Tianqian World, Qingzhou, Mo Set Dan Qing Mountain. Xiaoqiu, the border of Mo Men Dan Qing Mountain is right ahead. Don't go looking around now. Okay. Xiaoqiu, this is the first time you're heading up the mountains. I would like you to familiarize yourself with Dan Qing Mountain surroundings. Mo Sect, Lu Dong Li. I'll also tell you about the sect rules and some things you should take note of. I'll listen carefully, Master. The sect rules are. I'm done with the sect rules, now for the important points. We're the MO sect. Including you, there are a total of 10 members. I have 6 disciples. Another one of them is the disciple of the sect leader. The sect leader is my older brother, he's 6 years older than me. Therefore, you have to treat him respectfully from now on, far more than you respect me. However, you're not allowed to be alone with him or to learn from him. I, I can't be alone with him. Does that mean the sect leader eats little kids? No. He doesn't eat kids, but it's even scarier than that. He has an illness. Sai, my little sister, you have no idea where I, your older brother, have come from nor how much I've seen through this noble Tianqian world. Everything here is only a game and I am stuck in this game world. My older brother, he's always spouting nonsense. Seen through the Tianqian worlds? Game? Big brother? Is your head still working? Sob sobs, I've lived for over 40 years, only the two of you have given me warmth that I've never had, sobs. Father. Mother. Big brother, you're only 19. After our parents passed away, he couldn't remember his real age anymore, even saying things like he has the main character's template. What does a main character template have to do with the death of our parents? Sigh, my older brother's mind has some screws loose. M.O. sect only depends on my cultivation to maintain its reputation. I have to get stronger so that no one can bully my older brother. That person, is he the sect leader? Brother. If the heavens never gave life to me, Lu Chao Ge, then Tian Qian will live in darkness for millions of years. Don't listen to it. That man. How handsome. Is, is he the legendary sect leader? Child, you're lucky to be able to join my MO sect. This might be the greatest fortune in your life. Xiao Qiu has great talent. It wouldn't be hard at all for her to be accepted by the best sex. Our MO sect is only a small existence, not even in the top 300 sword sex. I'm the fortunate one to accept her as my disciple. How could brother say something as shameless as luck and greatest fortune? Oh no. Xiao Qiu will get influenced. This is wrong teachings. Big brother, Xiao Qiu must be tired now so I'll bring her to get some rest. Uncle sect leader. Don't look back. Xiao Qiu. Who knows where Xiao Li Zi picked up a child like her. All her stats are really high. Luck 9. It seems like it's not us who picked her up, but because she has high luck that she was able to meet us. 21 years. I've arrived in this game world, Tianqian world for 21 years now. Tianqian World is the biggest scale virtual world game in the 22nd century. Many people refer to it as God's creation. Some say it's truly a virtual world. There are even people calling it a parallel world and that the players are holograms. There weren't any cheat codes in these 21 years. If I calculate it correctly, this game will soon undergo beta testing. The beta testing stage will soon commence. Certain functions have been unlocked. Heh, as I expected. You've obtained the right to access your character stats panel. Would you like to check it? Check. Lu Chao GE level, 10, human, character, health points, 510 slash 510, spiritual level, 1295 slash 1300, core bone, 1, can be leveled up, capped at 10, swordsmanship, 1, can be leveled up, Capped at 10, luck, 3.141, 5926, 
permanently stuck at this level, not upgrade able, charm, 10, reached maximum level, initial stage completed, a really handsome but useless character. The rest looks fine, since I can just level them up. But this luck stats, why does it look like the value of pi? Whatever. It seems that even the system acknowledged my handsomeness. Being weak is temporary, but being good-looking lasts forever. Till the start of the beta testing stage, the remaining Earth days 30 days. 30 days on Earth would mean 300 days in the Tianxian world. In 300 days, there will be Nob players arriving. Earth, Nob players, such distant words. There was a time when I was once part of that world, which I no longer have any attachment to. I'm Lu Chao Ji. Aside from being born with my handsome look, I'm also a rich kid envied by many. Female streamers, cosplayers, and all that, I can get my hands on any of them I want. That's right. In my previous life, I enjoyed playing with not only people in real life, but also people in games. Of course, I was just an average player. The only speciality I had was the power of money. Damn it, attack already. What a bunch of useless trash. Why did all of you die? Why can't you guys be more like me and use a few millions? The monsters won't be able to even touch you then. Hey, I'm hungry. Dad, Mom, is the food ready? Because they were too rich, my parents stopped coming home anymore except for getting their divorce certificate. I'm an orphan, with both parents alive. My only form of communication with them is only transactions after transactions as well as some occasional calls to talk about the transactions. As for the phone calls I dial over, they would never pick them up. I don't even know where they are now. You guys would understand it. With a life like mine, it didn't have to take long before I lost interest in everything. Because, although I could have anything I wanted, I also lost everything I had. When I opened my eyes again, I realized I was born again. Let's see. Our son will be called, uh. Let's name him, Lu Chao Ji. Chao Ji. Lu Chao Ji. I never ever thought that not only would I be born again, but I would acquire what I dream of in my previous life. Among the hundreds of thousands of things in the world, only love and affection would never disappoint. The mission function has been unlocked. Will you accept the SEC mission? Accept. I wasn't idle in these past 20 years. I've accumulated over 20 years of experience. Yet, I wasn't able to level up or accept any missions. But now that there is one, only an idiot wouldn't accept it. Scanning the sect. Your identity has been confirmed. Your identity is MO Sect, Sect Leader. You've successfully acquired the main sect mission to strengthen and expand the MO sect. Click here for more information on the mission. Strengthen and expand the MO sect. It was father's long cherished dream for MO sect to grow. Of course, I'd be more than willing to do it. Click here for more information on the mission. Grading MO sect, start. Such great effects you have, system. MO sect unqualified. Although I knew our MO sect is nothing special, but to be unqualified, not much harm is dealt, but it sure feels insulting. According to what I know, the lowest sects in Tianxian world are in the ninth rank, while the sword sect, which is a part of the top four biggest sects, is considered first rank. Sword sect, first rank, other lowest sects, ninth rank, MO sect, Unqualified, history also recorded that special rank existed as well, but it's no longer around now. The worst is only ninth rank, so why would my MO sect be greeted as unqualified? Maybe there's a bug in this system? Requirement to reach a ninth rank sect 1, the sect must have 10 members. Fulfilled, requirement to reach a ninth rank sect 2, the sect leader's required level, first rank. MO sect, sect leader Lu Chao GE, Begin a rank, unfulfilled, note, there is no bug in the system, just a certain person merely lacks self-awareness. 
Who would have thought the problem lies in me? It seems like I'll have to go down the mountains tomorrow to get my breakthrough. Speaking of which, if my MO sect is unqualified, it should have been kicked out of the 300 sects under the sword sect, yet. There's someone in the sword sect that belonged to MO sect. Having connections feels great. Offerings are here. Are you there? I forgot to mention before, but aside from the 10 official members in my MO sect, there's someone else who's away. Fortunately, you're still here. This person was brought back by the 31st sect leader. Apparently, he showed his powers hundreds of years ago, and it was pretty strong. But he has chosen to live in seclusion now in the cemetery. Perhaps this is the saying, small-time hermits hide in the mountains, the real hermit lives in the city while the gods hide away in the cemetery? There's pros and cons to this. The good side is that if he were to die there, I won't have to waste any effort to make him a grave. While the bad side is that, I can never confirm if he's dead or alive. MO6 Highest Authority Meeting MO6 Sect Leader, Elder Lu, the matter of going down the mountain this time, let's settle on that. Brother, is your acting addiction surfacing again? MO6 Elder Shut up! Such disrespect towards the sect leader, I'll punish you by pinching your cheeks. To think you'd lean backwards, are you serious? It's just a small gesture. Brother, explain yourself clearly first. Why do you want to go down the mountain? Many dangers lie ahead. Cultivating in the mountains, isn't that great? Because, I want to achieve breakthrough by going down the mountains. To achieve breakthrough, I need the marrow cleansing spirit grass, but we have nothing left to sell for money, so I have to dig it out myself. What? Brother, you finally want to achieve breakthrough? What's there to be so surprised about? How many years has it been since you achieved beginner's rank? I thought you had truly became a, who would have thought? There are miracles in this world. I dare you to say out what you just censored there. I'm telling you, don't bully me so much. Aside from achieving breakthrough this time, I also want to spread MO6 name throughout Tianqian world. To bring honor to our ancestors. Oh, it has started again. My brother's tendency to show off, it's been happening more often these days. Let's get ready to leave then. Ready for buns? Where are the buns? Hey Ting, Lu Chao Ji's only disciple, but since he's not very recognizable, his introduction will be skipped to save some panels. Elder Lu Dong Li, must we wear such ordinary clothes? With an outfit like this, who would know I'm a sage? How would others know I'm of such outstanding nature? How would they know? Shut up. The more normal it is, the better. Being so brazen attracts unwanted attention. You should be more mature. Sai, my younger sister is too mature. What should I do? That guy is still as loud as ever. So, what do you plan on doing? Master, the forest below us is actually red. That is the forest of flames, the place where we will search for the marrow cleansing grass. Master, why has the sect leader been staring in a daze since earlier on? He's cultivating. The art of sitting still and meditating is needed by every cultivator. Xiao Qiu, you have to learn from the sect leader more from now on. The sect leader is amazing. Meditating. Xiao Qiu wants to meditate in the future too. On the other hand, Lu Chao Ge currently is. Just actually choosing a mission from the system. Leveling up missions. Yellow, blue, purple, orange. As expected, it's the same with my previous life. The leveling up mission will pop up. Which should I choose this time? Most players will choose yellow, since it's simple and quick. That's why the majority love the yellow mission. Blue, purple, as for blue, it's what the expert players choose. While the purple mission is only chosen by professional players. Orange, for the orange mission, only one in the million would choose it. After all, only those with an enormous amount of money had the guts to choose this fatal mission. Yellow, blue, purple, orange, then, my choice would be. 
What is there to think about? If I had to do it, I'll choose the hardest one. Ding dash. Mission has successfully been acquired. Mission details, hey, so this is all there is to an orange mission. Hidden in invisibility. The winds are a little loud today. Master Ning, won't we be discovered if we followed them so closely behind? Well, even if I stood in front of Dong Li that brat and took off all my clothes, she still wouldn't be able to see me. There's no need to add such weird descriptions, Master. But I'm quite curious, whether it's out of admiration or jealousy that you tagged along to secretly watch Lu Chao GE advance to the next level. If I have to tell the truth, it should be hate. Hate? To be hated by Qingzhou's best and flawless swordmaster in the young generation, it's not an easy feat. We're entering the forest of flames now. We'll be leaving right after we get the marrow cleansing grass, so no loitering around. There are many wild monsters here, so be careful. Lu Dong Li, are you hiding your cultivation? You landed so stably just now, it shouldn't be something that can be done on your level. H how could that be? Ha ha ha. It's all written on your face. As expected, men can only depend on themselves, younger sisters cannot be depended on. Forget it, let's look for the marrow cleansing grass first. All right, brother. I'll check out the roots. Mission content, defeat a wild monster of level 10, boss level. Although it's an easy mission, there's something difficult about it. Does a level 10 boss really exist? Strong bosses are easy to find, since there is an abundance of strong monsters, but it's hard to find weak ones. We're in luck today. The marrow cleansing grass is just right there, and there's three of them in one spot. It smells good. Xiao Qiu wants to eat it. Don't move. It's a wild monster. A monster? Mission target locked on. No one shall move. This grass, I'll be eating it for sure. Not even Jesus can take it away. This is bad. My brother is acting up again. I knew it, that 3.1415926 luck stat of mine is all but a false pretense. Stumbling upon three marrow cleansing spirit grass as well as a monster that fits the mission requirement, how is that the luck of an ordinary person? Isn't he too brave? We're still clueless about the level of that monster hiding there, yet he's rushing in like that? Sect leader is so cool. Forget it. If the monster isn't strong, I'll leave it to my brother. But if it is strong, I can probably still kill it instantly. I must be on guard. Master, I could sense that the monster is at rank 9, and it has achieved the beginner's rank 2. Then, what do you think Lu Chao GE will do? They are on the same level, but monsters generally have a stronger body than cultivators, so it would be best to lure it out first then kill it in one move. What you said is indeed correct, however. Oops, I made a blunder. That guy has no strategies at all. Black Pattern Snake, Level 10, Rank, Pre-Boss Level A high-level hunter will always choose to appear as a prey instead. Sect Leader Look out! Pre-Boss Level, huh? It's probably from a high rank monster's bloodline. You want to eat me? I'll beat up your head till it's crooked. What's wrong? In nothing. How can it be? Been so many years, but my body still reacted on reflex. Senior Lu, he's the one who bullied us. He said he's some kind of sword master, ugh, he even said we're not worthy to be his opponents. How dare you? I'm the flawless sword master, respected by... Anyone who got admitted later than me will address me as their senior. I don't give a damn about who you are, but you have to call me senior. That one slap completely woke up my young and arrogant self. But what made me submit to him was not because of that slap. Instead, it's that abnormal cultivating speed and his observation skills. Just like in this moment, he managed to hit that monster's vital weak point in one move. All right. 
you may turn into my experience points. Sect leader is so strong. Even though he could have just killed it with one swing of his sword, he insisted on wasting his spiritual power by using finger or a blade. This fighting style of his is completely not dependable. What if there's another monster? Black pattern snakes can shoot out poisonous mist before they die. I wouldn't want to get close and get hit by that. Don Lee and the others would be terrified. It's about time I clean this all up, I suppose. You've succeeded in killing the monster, Black Pattern Snake, and acquired 10,000 experience points. Orange, your level up mission has been completed. Do you want to accept the mission rewards? Not bad at all. To think I was given 10,000 experience points. I accept the mission rewards. Attribute Awakening Coupon? I can't believe it's an orange level Attribute Awakening Coupon. When a cultivator breaks into the beginner's rank, if they have extraordinary talent or they are favored by some gods, they will acquire the chance to awaken their attribute once. Attribute awakening means they can hold another affinity. By changing their spiritual attribute through attribute awakening, they can strengthen their affinity. For example, if lightning is chosen, it will become thunder attribute. If gale is chosen, it will become wind attribute. Don Lee has the wind attribute, while Yu Yu has the fire attribute. As for my own attribute, what will it be? Whoa ho! Let's go! If I stayed any longer in this forest of flames where it's full of danger, it'll be like asking for my life to be cut short. I'll get the grass first, then find a safe place to awaken my attribute. That's the intelligence that a main character should have. Let's go! Just one of this grass is sufficient. And for the remaining two, let's leave it for whoever needs it. Sect leader leave the task of finding a safe place to me. Master looks extra sensitive to the word safe. They left in such a hurry without even harvesting the remaining marrow cleansing spiritual grass. Is he planning on having his breakthrough right away? You're half right. The other half would be, even if Lu Chowga did bring these home, he couldn't possibly store them since they'd wilt soon. This is a spiritual box that can keep spiritual grasses. Let's gift both of these to them. The old saying is right. If there's someone above you looking after you, things will go smoothly. I've finished checking the 5M radius in the surroundings. There's no traces of strong monsters or any living human's presence. This place is safe. 5M radius, I'm only going to have my breakthrough, it's not like I'm trying to survive a heavenly tribulation. Safety is the most important thing. Wasn't that what you taught me? Ah, uh, did I teach you that before, whatever, that's not important. Well trained. Your brother senses that, as if something would leap out of my body soon. Brother, could it be that you'll have your breakthrough? Sect leader, are you going to eat this fragrant spiritual grass now? A, are you not going to share some with Xiao Qiao? Are you really not going to share some with Xiao Qiao? Of course not. Since after eating it, you'll be in a lot of pain. Master, hurry up and help the sect leader. He ate something wrong. He's probably going to have a stomachache. Are you finally going to break through your rank? Yu Yu. Both you and Little Lizzie awakened your attribute when you broke through your rank, right? Yes, Master, that is indeed true. Then, do you think Chao Ge will have a chance at awakening his attribute too? Impossible. You sure got quite worked up. Master, what your disciple is saying, there has never been a successful example of someone awakening their attribute past the age of 16 since ancient times. Since ancient times, even among the talented geniuses, this has never happened before. I believe Lu Chaoga won't be able to awaken his attribute too. H.M., you memorized the ancient scrolls well. What a waste. If only Lu Chaoga had his breakthrough much earlier, there would be a chance to awaken his attribute. But now, that's no longer possible. That's a tribute awakening. Brother is actually going to awaken his attribute. What? Someone awakened their attribute. Damn. Missing such a good show would be such a waste. Hurry up. 
Let's go watch it. The cultivators in Tianqian world are a little different from others. Even though they have too long of a lifespan, instead of becoming disinterested in things, they became especially interested in joining in the fun. There are lowly mongrels who don't know their place. How dare they come to watch and have fun with one of my people awakening their attribute? What the? This is the strength of a great cultivator. So it's the disciple of a great cultivator that's awakening his attribute, this kind of scene, it's better not to watch it, or we might lose our lives, we're leaving. Anyone who breaks into the fifth rank and above are all monsters. This place is. Are all these heaven and earth's energy? The attribute that belongs to me, which is it? This isn't right, they're all avoiding me? This is the one that belongs to me, so it's you. It's unique and one of a kind, truly befitting of someone like me. Master, what's going on? This is for you, be careful when you eat it. If it hurts, then call out to me. Could Master be too surprised to see me wake up this fast? Though, the taste of the marrow cleansing grass sure is great. But it doesn't seem like she's looking at me, Master, what are you looking at? Ed, the waterfalls flow. Why did it stop? Ah, what a blinding, golden light. Attribute awakening, you awaken your attribute. To think it's the heavenly order. Only the number one attribute awakened who wields the power of heaven and earth can receive the heavenly order. Both little Li Zi and you didn't manage to trigger it, since you were not the first attribute awakened of wind and fire, could this mean? That's right, not only did he awaken his attribute, he's also the very first attribute awakened, who wields the power of heaven and earth. However, what kind of power of heaven and earth has senior brother obtained? It's water. Attribute awakening. What an eye-opening moment this is. I wonder which sex disciple he is, to be able to call upon the heavenly order. How many times will he trigger the heavenly order? If it's only four to five times, then there's nothing impressive about it. Attribute awakening. I can't open my eyes, who exactly is talking, with such a loud voice too. Attribute awakening, attribute awakening, attribute awakening. This is the sixth time? Six times, it has sounded for the six times. Brother, hang in there. Last until the ninth, no, even the eighth time will do. According to the ancient scroll, of all the ones who could trigger the heavenly order before, the lowest managed to get six times. For those aiming for above six times, it depends on the cultivator himself. How many times do you think Chowgut can trigger the heavenly order? The more times, the better, a him, master, how could I possibly guess when it's the heavenly order? Attribute awakening. Attribute awakening. I think, I understand now. The heavenly order turns out to be the repeater. It's eighth time. Attribute awakening. Ninth. It's the ninth time. Nine times? My fate is up to myself to decide. This is something I've acquired on my own. Therefore, my attribute, awaken. Congratulations, you have successfully awakened your attribute and acquired the power of heaven and earth, water. Brother, how do you feel? Sect leader, the marrow cleansing grass's taste is pretty good, let's go get more. He he he. It feels like this world is a lot clearer now. This ability to control water, it seems really useful in many ways. Congrats, brother. You've acquired the water affinity through a tribute awakening. Ah. Ugh. I shouldn't be recalling the taste of marrow cleansing grass. It's making me drool all over. But marrow cleansing grass really did taste great. Not bad at all. Even the water in human bodies, I can control them too. The me right now can call upon water wherever and whenever I want, as long as there's a water source around. It seems like this ability is a lot stronger than what I imagined. 
I've finished erasing all the marks we left in the surroundings. We can head back home now. How dependable. Why did you erase them? No one will be able to see traces of the miracle I have created. What miracle are you talking about? It will only lead to death if it's discovered by powerful people. We have to stay low at all times. The man who has once dominated over me, maybe it's time he comes back. Not bad. That child, Chalga, has finally shown something promising. Something's wrong. Why do I feel like I had forgotten about something? What is it? Master, something's amiss here. Senior, Lu Chalga still hasn't achieved his breakthrough. You finally realized it. He awakened his attribute, yet did not break through the beginner's rank. Did Chalga run into some kind of trouble? I do hope nothing will happen to him. However, in Lu Chalga's mind right now, he's having a dilemma over something that's the complete opposite of their concern. Experience points have reached the maximum point. Do you wish to level up? Experience points? I have accumulated so many experience points. Now that i finally finished my level up mission, I can continue to level up. Now, the problem is, how many levels should I level up first? Not only can accumulating experience points restore my mana points to use powerful moves at crucial times, I can gain skill upgrades too. If I use up too much now, it might be more troublesome in the future. Raise your hand if you want to drink spirit spring water. Me? Brother, have a drink. I've decided I'll level up this much. Level up 11. Beginner's Rank Breakthrough Level up 12, Level up 13, Level up 14 Level up 15 B Brother, did you just broke through 5 levels with a cup of water? Yeah, what about it? Is that so weird? What the heck? Broke through 5 levels with a cup of water, that, he doesn't even need to sit down and meditate for that? Not bad at all. But even for a genius, it's impossible to level up five levels in one go, so how did he manage to do it? I understand now. I understand now. Senior Brother Chow GE must have intentionally stayed in the beginner's rank in the past. It must be that. I misunderstood him all this while. He never gave up on himself or refused to cultivate further. It turns out he had his own plans. You, you. If you were in his shoes, would you have been able to hold it in, not leveling up for all these years? I can't do it. I can't possibly compare myself to him. This guy broke through five times with a cup of water. It's actually not that shocking. After all, he was already different from other children since young. Despite being stuck in the beginner's rank for many years, there's not even a hint of disappointment, self-blame, or any negative emotions on him. This child has an unbreakable spirit for cultivating. Senior brother, why does master look so worked up? I don't know. Senior brother, you don't talk a lot, huh? Eh? M master, sect leader, what's going on? Congratulations, kid. From today onwards, you're a rank one cultivator. Ah? Uh, really? He he he. Detected that your sect, M.O. sect, has now fulfilled the standards of a ninth rank sect, will you accept the advancement? Advancement. What's there to hesitate about? Let's go. M.O. sect qualified, advancement successful. M.O. sect ninth rank. Mission completed, mission reward 1, experience points 50,000, mission reward 2, swordsmanship aptitude attribute point plus 1. A specific attribute bonus point. This reward is out of the world. With every one point added to swordsmanship aptitude, my sword aura attribute will gain a 10% increase in every aspect. Finally, my swordsmanship aptitude is no longer at 1. After this, I can try using those experience points to unlock the highest realm in sword cultivation, sword intent, health points, 700 slash 700 spiritual level, 1500 slash 1500 core bone. One can be leveled up, capped at 10, swordsmanship, two can be leveled up, capped at 10, luck, 3.141, 
5926 permanently stuck at this level, not upgradable, charm, 10 reached maximum level. Once I've unlocked sword intent, won't my skills skyrocket instantly? If I remember correctly, Yu Yu, that rude brat is one of the main characters in this world. He's born with swordsmanship aptitude, 10, known as the flawless sword master. Then, with this charm, 10 of mine, shouldn't I be called the flawless charmer? Why does it feel so indecent? Sec mission, the second ring. The second ring came so soon? Mission description, advancing MO sect from the 9th rank to the 8th rank. Mission reward, 200,000 experience points swordsmanship aptitude point. Mission requirement, 1. Accumulate 1,000 points for the sect's reputation. Current progress, reputation point, 307 slash 1,000 unfulfilled. 2. The sect must at least have 3 cultivators who have reached level 2 in cultivation. Current progress, January 3rd. 3. The sect must have over 100 disciples. Current progress, 10 out of 100. Our reputation points have increased a lot. But the mission to advance to 8th rank, it's quite a hassle. Player has reached level 15. A new function has been unlocked, Master Disciple System. Oh, I nearly forgot about this. I can gain experience points by accepting disciples, even though it's half of theirs, it's still better than none. Master Disciple System Master, Lu Jing Fong When he watched the nurse carry me out of the delivery room, I was crying at that time while he was smiling. When I saw him lying in the coffin, I was crying at that time, but he never gave me a response anymore. A poem from my previous life, I only understood its meaning in this life. You're two grown adults, how could both of you fit in that box at the same time? Dad, Mom, rest assured. M.O. Sick will definitely prosper in my hands. As for my disciple, H.M.? Disciple, Hei Ting, level 10. How did I end up forgetting him? Hei Ting is also level 10 now. It's time for him to achieve his breakthrough. This brat, it seems like he hasn't let go of that matter yet. Xiao Hei. Why are you still stuck in the first rank? If I remember correctly, you could have already had a breakthrough a long time ago. Evil has taken root deep within this child. He will certainly take the lives of many and rise up as a great force in the future. Beware of him. All of you better remember this. Evil has taken root deep within him. What if he brings misfortune to us? His parents have passed away already. Could he be the reason that they had died? He's just an orphan anyways. Why don't we just throw him out of the village? I am a disciple of the M.O. sect, Lu Chao Ge. Hurry up, bring this sect disciple a cup of water to drink. Who refers to himself so highly like that? That outfit, he does seem a lot like a cultivator. What a handsome cultivator. By the way, I overheard most of what they said earlier. Are you the one who has evil planted in you? The type that will kill many people and rise up against the world? I'm lacking a sword boy to serve under me. Are you willing to do it? It doesn't matter if evil has rooted itself in you, or you will take the lives of many. In the future, cultivator, that child isn't normal. What shall we do if that child really commits heinous acts in the future? Cultivator, don't attract fire that it burn yourself. All of you, shut up. From today onwards, I, Lu Chao Ge, he will be my disciple. Whatever happens in the future, I'll take responsibility. Follow closely behind me. If you fall down, I won't care about you. Dan Ching Mountain. Looking closely, you really do look very ugly. You snot-nosed brat, the road ahead is very harsh, so grab tightly onto my hand. There's an old saying that goes like, the best way to create a great evil is to give him a bunch of abilities, then let him lead a horrible life, show him a glimmer of light, and lastly, put out that glimmer of light. However, you're different, because this light of yours is the future most dependable person in the whole world of Tianxian. 
Did you think this matter was like a mist clouding your heart? But there is no mist in this world that cannot be dispersed. In the year 14921 of the Tianqian calendar, Mo Six eldest disciple, He Ting, broke through the beginner's rank with just one look at the skies. Your disciple, He Ting, has successfully leveled up. You've gained 5,000 experience points. As expected of me, I really am talented when it comes to teaching and educating others. The sect leader, you, you're really amazing. Senior, Lu Chao Ji, he's amazing. To think there exists such a way to use the power of heaven and earth. Originally, I thought there is not much use to awakening his attribute in the beginner's stage, but he actually used that ability to dispel the mental barrier that's hindering his disciple's heart. As expected of senior brother Lu Chaoga, only he is capable of doing something like this. Hmm, look at them, they really are an ill-fated pair. Brother, both you and Hei Ting have gotten your breakthroughs, it'll be more convenient to travel by flying on an item from now on. Speaking of which, where is my item? How great would it be if I can get something limited edition from Auntie Ning, like her leaf boat? What is limited edition? Can you eat that? Xiao Qiu is hungry. I'm in quite a good mood today. Elder Dong Li, find a place for us to descend and I'll treat you all to something good. Great. Ah, uh, Master, you're suddenly moving so fast. Don't run your mouth now, you'll understand once you've tasted it later. Sect leader, is he really good at cooking? I'll go catch some fish. M Master, Sect Leader, what's going on? Congratulations, kid. From today onwards, you're a rank one cultivator. Ah, uh, really? He he he. Detected that your sect, M.O. Sect, has now fulfilled the standards of a ninth rank sect, will you accept the advancement? Advancement. What's there to hesitate about? Let's go. Senior brother's storage bag, it's used to store all these daily necessities? Xiao Qiu, come here. Sect leader will teach you a little on how to be a cultivator. Eh? Brother, look, I've caught these two fishes. When you've won in a match against your opponent, but they're still stubbornly arguing with you, what do you say in response? For example, it's not the road that's uneven. But you're simply too weak. Promising, you really are promising. Oh no. Xiao Qiu has been infected. Xiao Qiu, does it feel a little cold for you too? It does feel that way. Brother. Stay away from my disciple. Don Li. You absolutely cannot act like your sect leader. If one is not humble, they will definitely get beaten to death one day. Don't worry. M.O. Sect has me. Well said. This is the end. Xiao Qiu has completely been infected. Dan Qing Peak. We're home. Burp. Eh, did Master just let out a burp? Burp. Aren't you doing the same? It's because the fish soup that the sect leader made was too delicious. Burp. What a joke. To gain favorability from that person back then, I learned all sorts of Chinese and Western dishes. Chao Ji, Dong Li, you guys are back. Even though we secretly followed them all the way, we have to pretend it's a coincidence that we ran into them at the entrance. It really is such a waste that Master didn't become an actress. Auntie Ning, we were away on a trip. Did you wait for long? It's only a coincidence that we ran into each other. You've gotten your breakthrough. Good job. Master. You're truly a natural when it comes to acting. Auntie Ning, seeing as I've just gotten my breakthrough, won't you give me a leaf boat as a reward? You brat. Fine. I'll promise you that. H.M.? It's you, little brat. He he he, senior brother Lou. This you you, something feels off with him. Whenever I hit him in the past, he would definitely retaliate and fight back. Why does it seem like he's enjoying it today? This you, it can't be that he picked up some weird kinks, right? 
A him. A him, a him. L let's get in first before we continue talking. All right. But if you run into any problems while cultivating, your auntie Ning can give you some pointers if you want. Don Lee must have a lot to ask. Let me show you the way. Yup. Auntie Ning, I'd like to ask. Auntie Ning, I finished asking all my questions. Thank you. Chow Ge, don't you have anything to ask? I do. I'd like to know, for someone wielding the sword with a cultivation level that isn't considered high, is it better to cultivate further and break into higher ranks first, or to cultivate their sword intent first? Sword intent? Sword intent. The reason I'm asking this question is mainly because unlocking sword intent takes 10,000 experience points, but the same amount of experience points can help me level up three times, so which one is greater? Sword intent or levels? Chow Ge, theoretically speaking, as someone who wields the sword, it's definitely better to master the sword intent as early as possible. Since ancient times, every single cultivator who has reached the peak of swordsmanship had mastered the sword intent much earlier than any other people. Once you've mastered the sword intent, every time you break through a rank, your ability will be greatly enhanced. As for swordsmanship cultivation without sword intent, your ability's improvement will only be that of a cup of water. Meanwhile, if you mastered the sword intent, your ability's improvement could be like a cup and a half of water, or even two cups of water. However, even though sword intent is extremely important to someone who cultivates with a sword, with Chao Ge's current cultivation, he's still far from being able to master it. If he insists on mastering it first, I'm afraid it'll be a fruitless effort and he'll waste precious time. Auntie Ning, I understand now. I'll quickly master the sword intent. I won't disappoint your expectations for me. When did I express such an expectation of you? Quickly master the sword intent? That's impossible. Why is it impossible? Anyhow, it's definitely impossible. Humph. Senior brother, the sword intent is not as shallow as you think it is. To step into the gates of sword intent, I cultivated like I had descended into madness, wandering between life and death even then, half a step is all I could achieve. If I mastered the sword intent at my age, I'll be able to surpass all the sword sovereigns who did the same throughout history. Sword Sovereign Sword intent, it's not something that can be taken so lightly by you. This brat. He umfed me. How dare he umf me. He's dead. Brother, he's biting more than he can chew. But at such a time, I can't point out his faults. Because, brother's reputation, I'll protect it. Haha, ha, it seems like there's a small conflict between you two. I heard that you you is now half a step into the gates of sword intent. How about? The two of you exchange some blows and learn from each other? All right. Since it's a competition focusing on the sword intent, you you, you'll have to lower your power to that of Chao Ge so that it's fair. No problem. Then, do enlighten me. Unsheath your sword. What a great sword. You, you sure has nurtured that sword really well. The three of you are around the same level. Other people's swords may be great, but yours are not too shabby either. What's there to be amazed about? He he. Master, is Uncle Yu Yu that skilled? He is. That senior brother Yu Yu remains one of the most outstanding young cultivators among the younger generation. You can even say he's the strongest in this generation. Younger generation. It looks like it's a sure win for sect leader. Senior brother Chao Ge, why aren't you unsheathing your sword? Because lives will be lost. Are you saying I'm not worthy enough for you to unsheath your sword? Lu Chao Ge, unsheath your sword. No, you got it wrong. I sealed my sword for nine years, but it wasn't to wait for you. Stop talking and start fighting back. Since you're not willing to unsheath your sword, then I'll force you to. Sect leader, how amazing. Holding his ground till now with those tricky moves, it truly isn't easy. 
If this goes on, brother, he's going to lose for sure. Unsheath your sword. Unsheath your sword. Unsheath your sword. Unsheath your sword. Refusing to use your sword intent that's taking shape, yet you're stubbornly forcing me to unsheath my sword? Fine. I'll unleash my sword intent as you wish. My sword, it's getting affected by you use sword intent. Is this what sword intent is? Hey, your sword intent is too shabby. It can't even affect my sword. Extremely stable. This is my strongest sword actic. Lu Chao GE, you better look out. So this is the difference between having a sword intent and not. I understand now. Unlock it. Unlocking sword intent minus 100,000 EXP. Sword intent level 1 minus 1 million EXP. Lone sword, here I come. Senior brother Chao GE, quickly get your act together already and catch up to my steps. Brother. Look out. You use Lone Sword can't be withdrawn once it's unleashed. As expected of a sword skill passed down by a sword sovereign. However, no one can harm Chao GE right in front of me. Eh? Chao GE, how many more surprises are you going to show your anti name? This, this is? This, this is? Brother, has awakened his sword intent? Sect leader looks like someone who walked right out of a painting. From today onwards, every weird occurrence that Xiao Qiu encounters in the future will only appear to be normal and insignificant. Sword intent. W. Watt a familiar feeling. One can acquire it as long as they're smart enough, isn't it? Hey. A. A. Complete sword intent. That's impossible. Impossible. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. You've lost. Why, why did it turn out this way? I sealed my cultivation to train my swordsmanship. I sparred with other skilled masters. I fought against ferocious beasts. To master the sword intent, I sacrificed so much, yet. I understand now, in such a way, he acquired it so easily, why? I've lost, but there's something that I don't understand. Senior Brother Chauga, I hope you can answer my question and dispel my doubt. Spiritual Wind Technique, cast it. Speak. Senior Brother Chao GE, I've read the ancient records left behind by our ancestors in the Sword Pavilion. Throughout the history, our sword master seniors said that before breaking into the third realm, don't even think about mastering the sword intent, it'll be all for naught. I've also consulted Lord Sword Saint on this matter before too. He said that with my strength, I'll be able to master the sword intent once I enter the third realm and that'd be an impressive feat. You, you doesn't understand. How did senior brother Chao GE manage to achieve it? Little you you. You have your ancestors' ancient records that you can access at any time and you have a sword saint senior whom you can ask any questions at. That's equivalent to standing on the shoulders of a giant. Since you're already standing on the shoulders of a giant, why not try setting your sight on something higher? Isn't history something to be surpassed? History is something to be surpassed. It has started again, brothers acting out again. So, that is how it is. I'm indeed not comparable to senior brother Chao GE's temperament. Oh no. Yu Yu got affected too. Yu Yu has another question, senior brother Chao GE, when exactly did you start comprehending the sword intent? The very moment I held the sword in my hand. Since you held the sword. I'm really not lying here. The sword intent was exchanged with experience points and my experience points are accumulated from the moment I first held a sword. Hmm, it makes total sense. Even if I'm a cheater, at least I'm a hard-working one. Yu Yu has been enlightened. What a harmonious picture this is. Chao Ji, that child. 
He has always managed to sharpen Yu's mindset. They truly do share such a genuine friendship. Senior brother Chao Ji, there's actually another matter. Why does he have so many questions? Senior brother Chao Ji, may I have a look at your sword? You'll die. Bi Yu Wan has not been unsheathed for the past nine years. This sword is not prepared for you. Was it due to that incident? That year, there was a mysterious monster that caused a mess in Qing Zhou. Lu Chao Ji's parents encountered it by chance. The two of them worked together and heavily injured the monster, but they died in the process as well. If this sword of his is truly prepared for that monster, it'd mean it contains 10 years of effort to keep it unsheathed in the scabbard. I'm truly not worthy to face it. The day it gets unsheathed will also be the day I exact my revenge. Auntie Ning and Yu Yu will be staying over for the next few days. It's alright if it's just Auntie Ning, since she's preparing to craft a flying tool for me. Achu. Who's talking about me? Forget it. Let me cast another defensive spell for Chao Ji. That child has an appearance that attracts others to beat him up. Sigh. But that brat, Yu Yu. He's staying here because he was enlightened three times after our spar? Being enlightened for three times from getting beaten up by me? Even going as far as saying he'll fully master the sword intent after digesting everything, how great to be the main character of this world. Once I've finished digesting everything I've learned, I'll likely be able to fully master the sword intent. Thank you, senior brother. No, I'm a cheater. So why do I have to be envious of the main character? Furthermore, I've broken through the beginner's realm already. New skills are on its way to me now. Benefactor, are you still there? Benefactor, are you able to tell the difference between me today? Even though this benefactor isn't that smart, but the legend stated that her strength is really great. She should be able to at least tell that I've broken through. Can't you tell that I've attained my breakthrough? Don't you have any response to that? Fine. You won't even reply to me if I don't give you my blood essence. I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't because you helped M.O. Sect overcome a crisis a few hundred years ago. Although this benefactor is like a cheat, she's at least bound to the M.O. Sect by contract. She ensures our safety, but every generation sect leader has to pay a price for that. My father gives her a spiritual bead every month back then, yet when it came to my turn, she wants the most precious thing to mend blood essence. As the saying goes, one drop of semen is equal to ten drops of blood, so a single drop of blood essence. Good for you that you're happy. On the other hand, I'm sucked dry, phew, it's unfortunate that there's no incense in this world. If it wasn't because of the generous condition you set, I wouldn't really want to give you. Air Condensing Technique, the second volume, Purple Rank, Mid-Tier Item. This is it. Aside from providing defensive function to M.O. Sect, she also gave me a Purple Rank Cultivation Technique. In Tianqian World, every sect doesn't have a fixed cultivating technique. Every cultivator also cultivates differently. Usually, a blue rank technique is already very impressive, but a purple ranked one is even more mind-blowing. This cultivation technique works by liquefying your surrounding spiritual aura and then absorbing it into your body as if you're drinking water. It's mentioned in 108 ways of drinking as well as how to turn air into water. This technique is a perfect match with my water attribute. This purple rank low tier air condensing technique would be even considered as the most valuable treasure in one of the Qingzhou's best sword sects. A. Purple rank. Mid tier item, purple. Rank you mid. Tier. Benefactor, did you make a mistake by giving this? How is this a purple rank, mid tier item? Did you really make a mistake? Why are you malfunctioning? Could it be that the air condensing technique given by the benefactor, the rank is different for each volume? 
It'll only get more and more terrifying for the future volumes. There's a chance it might be an orange rank cultivating technique in the future. If that's really the case, then this blood essence of mine, I can still squeeze out few more of it. How about I'll squeeze a few more drops of blood essence in exchange for the other volumes? Blank point JPG. Fine, I understand. You're saying, you should know, that I've lost my memory, so I don't know anything else. Why can I understand what you're trying to convey? Are we in sync? That's not it. It's because I'm used to you already. Even knows how to wave goodbye to me, she's only that happy when she gets to have my blood essence. Thinking from a different perspective, I sure am a good man. How did it end up like this, why? Master, don't cry. The M.O. sect still have me in the future. It's exactly because you're like this that I feel hopeless. The M.O. sect already has my brother like that, but my disciple also ended up the same way. Won't she get beaten to death the second she steps out of the sect? Is it because Xiao Qiu is unique and unlike any other? This little brat has acquired 30% of my brother's essence. I can only protect her with a different way. Xiao Qiu, whenever you leave the mountains from now on, you're not allowed to say you're the disciple of Lu Dongli. You have to say that you're Lu Chaoga's disciple. Xiao Qiu, your master truly has no other way but to do this. In the stories my brother told me, there are many great geniuses, but they don't have much of other interests except for showing off and giving people a slap. Then Xiao Yin shouted loudly, he said, don't you dare bully the poor, after beating up the apprentice. Then next they'll to beat up their master. After beating up the small ones, then they'll beat up the elders. Basically they'll just beat everyone up according to the ranks of the sect clan. There won't be people coming to beat me up because of Xiao Qiu in the future, right? Maybe I should pass her to brother right away? But, sigh, I'll just make her training harder. Since they'll beat up everyone in the sect regardless of age anyways, I might as well do it so that they can't even touch the child. As long as no one can defeat Xiao Qiu, there's nothing I have to worry about, right? Lu Donli's eyes shone with an intelligent sparkle. From today onwards, Xiao Qiu will be the one to shut down Lu Donli's gate for accepting disciples. First, I won't accept any other disciples anymore. Second, Xiao Qiu won't be allowed to leave the mountains until she cultivates to a passable standard. I'll close the gate of attracting trouble for her. I swee. That won't do. There has to be a backup plan for everything, I know. I swear on Lu Donglis, my brother's life. Great. Everything is well prepared now. I definitely won't train up another disciple who'd turn out like that Luo Bing. Someone who I treated like a precious disciple, yet she wants to become my sister-in-law. He he. Speaking ill as some of me? Let's see. Cultivation is important, but experience points are the most important. Lu Chaoga appears like a divine being when he cultivates. EXP plus 10,000, EXP plus 10,000, EXP plus 10,000. EXP plus 10,000, he gathered the spiritual energy in the atmosphere and absorbed it into his body to gain experience points quickly, scouring his flesh in the process. However, the scouring of flesh is no different from injecting air into his blood vessels. It hurts just from imagining it. That's why the air condensing technique is similar as dysmenorrhea. This is enough. I can only endure this much pain tonight. I can't possibly throw my life away for a little more experience points. Cultivating and gaining experience points, can it be any easier and more comfortable? If only Benefactor gave me a double cultivation technique instead, how much greater would that be? If that's really the case, then I will have to be sucked dry? Huh? That's... Auntie Ning, why did you come here? The spiritual tool that you wanted has been completed. We're preparing to be on our way back to Sword Sect, so we specially came to send this over first. Senior brother, I'm here too, ignored. Auntie Ning, do you really have to leave so soon? Do you think your Auntie Ning is so free? 
There's a lot of troublesome matters to deal with at the sword sect, far more than you can imagine. Here, this is for you. Take it. Do you like it? Leaf Light Boat Blue Rank, Lower Level Item Hidden Effect, One-Time Use of Water Curtain Spell Once used, it'll return to its original rank. Leaf Light Boat is usually a yellow rank, upper level transportation tool. Anti Ning actually managed to add in a hidden spell in and upgraded it into a blue rank, lower level item. Anti Ning definitely cares about me a lot. What is it? You don't like it? With Chowga's current strength, he probably can't see through the water curtain spell I've casted in this. No, I really like it. Just that it feels a little out of the ordinary to me. Work hard on cultivating from now on then. Perhaps then you'll be able to see through it. With his current cultivation, he actually managed to pick up on it. This brat, does he have a talent in refining? That's a given. To live a long life, I must cultivate properly. For a long life. Aying, my life goal is to live till I'm 500 years old. This is my biggest dream in cultivating. Yet, someone with a goal like you still bravely charged ahead at that time. Mother once told me that she wanted to live up to 500 years old. It's unfortunate that she passed away so early. We'll celebrate her birthday each year, so I have to live that 500 years for hers at least. I understand. If that's the case, Chowga, I've recorded 10 types of simple spiritual tool refining techniques in this jade slip. If you're interested, try learning them. It's not a harm to pick up more skills. Since you were able to see through the hidden effect in that tool, there's a chance that you're gifted in this field too. I got a skill book this easily for free. We'll be leaving first then. Okay, have a safe journey, Auntie Ning. Senior brother, me too. Okay, okay, leave already. Auntie Ning, feel free to drop by again. Gung Jean Sect. How bold of you, Gung Jean Sect. Sword Sect, one of the four top sects in the world Qingzhou's strongest sect. The Sword Sect leads over 300 sects under them. Sword Sect. And among these sects, they are divided into upper hundred sects, middle hundred sects, and lower hundred sections, upper hundred sects, middle hundred sects, lower hundred sects. Lower hundred sects, the peak, the bottom, MO sect. And MO sect is within the lower hundred sections that's right it's the lowest rank of lows. Why rank those in the lower hundred sects? The strong shine in their own way, but the weaker ones are more or less the same, aren't they? Looking at this gung gene sect who came to raise up a ruckus. Its position lies in the lower middle class. Lower middle class, how strong? A mere sect in the lower middle class dares to act so rashly with us, the M.O. sect. How arrogant of them. Gung Jin sect, M.O. sect, Chiu Shui sect are three sects that coexist within a radius of 50,000 kilometers, and this 50,000 kilometers, M.O. sect is in control. Our M.O. sect took them in at first, but who would have thought they'd try to become the master of this land instead? In the past, the M.O. sect was always the one to make the decisions and invite all three sects for a gathering. Gung Jin sect is trying to climb all over us now that my dad is not around? Trying to act smart in front of me? Don't even think about it. Go back to where you came from. Gung Jin sect Chiu Shui sect's disciple, Lin Long sect leader he, now that the Gung Jin sect has prospered, it won't be long till it becomes the number one sect in this land. Heh, that M.O. sect only has Lu Chaoga who just broke through the beginning realm, the sect leader is only at that level, don't you think that's so embarrassing? Gung Jin sect sect leader, he too with his skills and talent, M.O. sect no longer has the right to fight with me anymore. The reply came this fast, that Brett must be terrified and shaking right now. Let's look at what he said. Is he going to kneel down and bow to you? Hey, it is now a generation where the strong can make others yield to them. It's time for M.O. Sick to give in. 
All right, let's take a look what he replied. Scene. Scene, that Brett, does he think he's looking through his subordinates' essays? That Brett has no manners at all. How arrogant. Humph, that Brett is so ordinary yet he has so much confidence. Such a good-for-nothing man. Sect leader he, that Brett is so rude. Let's teach him a good lesson in the gathering between the three sects. I have the same thought. Let's make up a good plan and make him realize what it means to respect the strong. M.O. Sect Brother, the gathering between three sects is in three days. Do you want me to go with you? Nah, there's no need. With you concealing your cultivation base, if I brought you along, people will think you're too weak and look down on our sect. I'll conceal less and show a little bit of it. How about that? No, just stay home obediently. This wind, it feels like the wind of pure desire. Eh, Luo Bing has broken through. That brat, how did she break through this fast? How could she not cultivate in seclusion for a few more years? I'm so angry. Do you dislike your main disciple that much? Look at the appearance of my main disciple and think back on yours. Why aren't you grateful? I'm sure you've fallen for her. I won't allow it. What are you on about not allowing it? Stop it already. My face value is going to drop because of you. 35 tails. 37 tails. 42 tails. The louder they cheered, the more pain I went through. As expected, humans' grief and joy are not connected. The me at that time fantasized like how it was written in the books. I wished for a young lord to descend like a god from the sky, saving me and bringing me away from here. But I knew those were only lies written by the authors. 10,000 tales. 10,000 tales. I'll have that girl. Lu Dong Li who has changed her appearance. Damn it. That guy must be out of his mind. Buying her first night for 10,000 tails, does he have too much money to burn away? He must be an idiot. He has a decent appearance, but his intelligence can't be depended on. This young lord here, buying a first night with 10,000 tails, you sure have good taste. This person does look quite decent. But there is no difference between him and the other customers. Who said I'm buying her first night? 10,000 tails, I'm buying and leaving with her. He's buying me. 10,000 tails. 10,000 tails, HM? I'm not losing anything by selling her off at this price. Since our line of work is usually short-lived. And one often loses their life early. What are you still standing there for? Go over to your master. Master. Here you go. That night, on my 11th birthday, he was like a god who descended down. Damn it, why, why is my disciple someone who only thinks about becoming my sister-in-law and stepping all over me? My name is Luo Bing. I was abandoned by my parents when I was six years old and got sold to the brothel. I was raised for five years there and was taught many things including reading, writing, and how to please a man. Is this the main dish for tonight? She's developed well. I heard it's her 11th birthday today and it will be her first night. Whoa. Then I must have her. The auction for Binger's first night will now commence. The starting price is 10 tails. 15 tails. 17 tails. 20 tails. 21 tails. Screw you. Do you really have to compete with me like this? This little girl is born with an appearance that draws you in. Her first night is driving so many men crazy. It's about to reach 30 tails soon. My first night in the past was only worth eight tails. I sure am envious of that little girl. Eight tails isn't a small amount. 
Those stinky men are people who only care about appearances. What else would they look for in a place like this, if not appearance? Humph, I'm skilled in arts and I'm good with words. Playing any musical instruments, singing, what is there that I do not know of? Furthermore, she has only shown that little bulge. How can she compare to this fruitfulness of mine? A bunch of ignorant men. Young lord, this is her deed. From today onwards, she belongs to you. She must have accumulated many lifetimes of good fortune to be bought by such a handsome savior. If he doesn't mind taking me along, I'd even be willing to pay for him to do so. What a waste. If I was a few years younger, then I could have competed with that Luo Bing. Luo Bing, hurry up and call him your master. He'll be my master from now on. My deed is in his hands. No need for that. From today onwards, you are free. Is that guy an idiot? He ripped the deed that's worth 10,000 tails just like that. Young lord. He's not an idiot. From today onwards, I'll follow him, with or without a deed, that no longer matters. Let's go. Okay. Little sister, here, I'll lead the way. A flower lantern, how beautiful. It's my first time stepping out of that inn. From now on, there'll be more beautiful things for you to look at. Yeah, I've already seen it. The most beautiful thing in this world. Why is she staring at my brother so much? Look at me once at least. Do you want to take a stroll? It'd be a waste not to look at such beautiful flower lanterns. Sure. Damn it. My younger sister, do you really think walking like this is comfortable? Why do you care? Hey, I've hit the jackpot with the deal this time. With stats like that, it's already pretty good. Furthermore, Luo Bing, Corbone 8, Swordsmanship Talent 7, Luck 6 Special Trait, there's a chance of unlocking the hidden event. A chance of unlocking the hidden event, this is an extremely valuable treasure. 10,000 tails, it's merely spending the entire fortune of M.O. Sect, there's no way I'm making a loss here. Stop playing around. When our disciples come later, save me some face. Who wants to save your face? This is bad. That girl's about to take her leave. The scent of her pure desire wind has gotten stronger. Finally. I've finally reached the first rank. It has been quite a while since I met him. Come over to the bamboo house. Come over to the bamboo house. Bamboo house. House. Yes, young lord. Young lord, he's waiting for me. Just for me. This is the original way of sending yourself to one's doorstep. It seems like you've decided. Domly, you have to consider for your brother's sake too. Consider for your sake? The gathering of three sex. It's fine if you won't bring me along, but you're taking Luo Bing? Domly, are you jealous? Who would be? Let's hear it out first then. What kind of considerations do you have? On the surface, the gathering of the three sex may appear like it's just a gathering. But do you know the true meaning behind it? What is it? To show off each sex strength. If I brought Hei Ting, he would have two little presents. If I brought you, you'd be hiding all your strength anyways. After giving it some thought, the only one who could represent M.O. sex strength would only be Luo Bing. There's such a thing? The prettier the woman beside the sect leader is, the more effective it is to show off a sex strength. This is general knowledge. Taobao Sex Master Ma, Jing Dong Sex Master Lu. Whose secretary isn't both a strong and beautiful woman? Taobao Sect? Jing Dong Sect? What are those? Disciple Luo Bing greets the sect leader and master. Phew. The unique breathing method learned from the brothel. 
To think she was able to use and match it perfectly with the exhaustion after rushing here, truly a master among masters. Truly without much of a presence. Ah, there's also big senior brother. Every time I see her, I always end up recalling the feeling of looking through close-up photos on the internet. This elegance, it's exactly the same. The young lord's concentration is too strong. Even with my panting, standing pose, my voice, all the tricks I learned from the brothel have been used. Yet, he hasn't budged at all. If only, I could avoid master and spend some time privately with young lord, that'd be great. Oh, Luo Bing. I called you over this time to let you know, you'll be coming with me to the gathering of the three sects in three days. I almost forgot about the serious matter at hand. My ex-girlfriend in my past life also had pure desire wind. I couldn't help but lose myself recalling it. Isn't this the perfect chance? Understood, sect leader. This sinful disciple is smiling too happily now, isn't she? Damn it. Why must there be the creature called sister-in-law in this world? Did I do something to offend her? Seems like it's quite a serious offense, Master. How smart of you to be reminding me of that now. In and in no, that's not it, Master. And Master, let me pour you some tea. Senior brother, leave it to me. Tea arts, the art of pretending to show off your charms without meaning to while pouring tea. These tempting arts that I picked up from the brothel, even if it's Master. But why do I feel like Dongli, that brat isn't angry, but jealous instead? Completely ignored. How could this be? Once again, I've been completely ignored. Although Luo Bing's tea art was outstanding, but in my previous life. I have seen much greater tricks and have grown numb to it. The young lord, that cold gaze, that elegant air, such a pristine look, that's right. If he fell for me with small tricks like this, would he still be the young lord I know? Would he still be the young lord I'm deeply in love with? Come on. Play fair and use real actions to make him fall for you, Luo Bing. Luo Bing, you have to work harder. For the sake of love. Looking at her, is this girl determined mine to capture me? Damn it, why did things turn out in the opposite direction? I was the one doing the capturing in my past life, not the other way round. There are only three days left till the gathering of the three sections in these three days. Luo Bing found proper and improper reasons to stay in Lu Chao Ji's house, causing Hei Ting to lose his job. Senior brother, leave it to me. T art, the art of unintentionally revealing your neckline while wiping the table. Are you done? The table's going to lose a layer of its surface if you wipe it any further. Senior brother, I can do it. Aya. Aya, my clothes are all wet. T art, the art of we unintentionally getting your whole body wet and translucent. What's wrong? You can't even pour the water properly? Hey Ting, throw her out of here. Eh. Senior brother, leave it to me. Aya. T art. The art of pretending to fall, showing off your legs and falling onto the bed. Why are you rolling around in my bed like that? Hey Ting, change the bed sheet for me. Three days later, plus 1000 EXP, plus 1001 EXP, plus 999 EXP. As expected of the young lord. Even while cultivating, he maintains such a divine aura. Phew, let's go, we're leaving. That brat, Dongli. To think she's still angry and refusing to send us off. I'll teach her a lesson when I'm back. I'm so excited. This is my first trip with the young lord. Together, only the two of us, this clearly the same as. Sleeping in the same bed. What's that? Why did I say that out loud? This is bad. What did you just say? I, I said, the young lord is so outstanding and amazing, you'll definitely outshine everyone else at the gathering. With your brilliant countenance, you'll surely shock the other two sects to their cores, blah blah blah. 
At times like this, as long as you praise the man, it'll definitely be brushed aside. Master Old Bao said that before, the best compliment for men is you were amazing just now. What I did just now was the ultimate compliment. Ways to charm a man, compliments. Enough, enough. Stop licking my boots. Lick? Is he trying to say? I it must be what Master Old Bao told me. It's too sudden. Happiness came so suddenly. This happiness, too sudden. H.M.? Hey, calm down. Aya. Oh, Sai, your childhood education really does affect your entire life. Young Lord, do you want some spiritual water? Luo Bing, you don't have to serve me in such a way. But, I really was bought by you in the past. Deep down, she still thinks she's lower than others. Another cup, please. Yes, young lord. Do you really like to address me in that way? Yes, do you not like it? Does he prefer a more intimate way of addressing him? T then I'll just do it. Then, daddy? Shut your mouth right now. This little girl, her childhood education really, it truly ruined her. But despite saying that, men ultimately like being a father. The Gazing Mountains, the location for the gathering of three sects. This is the promised location. I've already rushed over here without taking up any extra time. Are they trying to scare me off? Young Lord, someone's here. Help, so ugly. There's no need to greet them. They've only been sent to pick a fight with us. Damn it, they're trying to show off their strength to the young lord. Humph. Heh, as I expected. I initially planned to let you have a taste of a main character's strength, but with the looks of things today, there's no need for that. Master sent me to scare this guy a little. I need to do well. Master sent me to assist him in scaring this guy a little. I need to do well. You guys are from the M.O. sect. Hump hump. Sai, the spiritual wind technique has been activated quietly. What's going on? Damn it. I'm not finished with my plan yet. He's showing off first. What should we do? We'll carry out our second plan. Disciple Zhong Cho, Shen Qingqing, greet sect leader Lu. The disgusting act of using their identities as his juniors and acting politely so that he can't find any faults in them. The disgusting part about this trick is that the politer we are, the harder it'll be for you to find fault. You can only suck it up. His only choice now is to tell us, no need for such courtesy. Despite being repulsed by our actions, that's all he can say to us. It's not a still scene. Why isn't he saying it yet? Is he acting deaf and mute? Whatever, let's get up first. What's going on? My body feels so heavy suddenly. I can't lift my head up, like something's suppressing me. Trying to play tricks with me, huh? I'm someone who can control water whenever and wherever I want to. Ugh, ugh. That's about enough. Ah. Ah. Humph. It's like a breeze for the young lord to play with you guys with his divine powers of water. Those were just some small, underhanded tricks. I'm not scared at all. Sect leader Lu, how about we take a seat in the pavilion and have a talk? Regarding the division of this land, my sect leader and Chiu Shui sect leader have already. This Lu Chaoga is just like what the rumors said. His cultivation is low. It should be fine if I just follow after him. We've already divided the land. The M.O. sect will only. Ah. W. What's going on? W. With just a finger. Too noisy. Hmm. As expected of the young lord. Utilizing the power of heaven and earth like this. Only he can think of using it this way. The young lord is still as dominating as usual. Ugh, hurry, stop the bleeding for me. See, can I stop the bleeding for him? 
What if that guy aims at my head with a finger? What should I do? Serve the tea. This, he's allowing me to treat his injuries? Ugh. The rumored useless sect leader, why does he have such a terrifying aura now? What's wrong? Thirsty? There's no way in hell he's asking if I'm thirsty or not. That's clearly means, get lost, or are you waiting for tea to be served? Seems like that woman understood your meaning. I'm left with only I'll kill you if you haven't scrammed it unsaid. Even a pig would understand by now. That's true, I misspoke. Sit down. There are no outsiders around here and the scenery is pretty nice. The Gung Jin sect and Chiu Shui sect would be returning in a while. Okay. Young lord, what you did just now was amazing. The art of flattery there's a need to flatter till the end. Young lord, today too, he's so stunning and charming. This girl is spreading her charms everywhere. This familiar scent is a perfect match from a young lady. I can't react to her or she'll get worse. A maiden in love like her might recall this memory many years later. Even the fresh blood spilled on the ground that didn't fit in this scenery will turn into red flowers that bloomed beside the pavilion. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! That guy is definitely a monster. Ayo! Aya! Yua! I have to escape quickly. I should hurry back and tell Master. Junior sister, why you can actually fly with your sword. Don't talk to me. Gung Jean sect. Second senior brother. Why are you so heavily injured? Why are there scratch marks on your face too? How despicable. This land must become ours. Ha ha ha. What you said is right, junior sister. Master. This is bad. Lu Chauga injured our people. Second senior brother's face was ruined with scratch marks. Damn him. Lu Chauga. How dare you? He can't contain his temper very well. Since it's not her disciple. Eat this. Speak, what exactly happened? Blah blah blah. You're saying, with just one flick of his finger, he cut your right leg? Furthermore, I also felt something else coming from him, an aura of the power of heaven and earth. What? A trash who got stuck in the beginning stage, how could that be possible? Master, I have something to say, can I? Don't hold back right now, say it. A few days ago, I heard that there was the birth of a genius on our land. He triggered the heavenly order for nine times. Everyone must have heard it, right? That nine rings of heavenly order were certainly shocking. Even I myself wanted to rush over to check right away. Who exactly is the person who triggered it? If it's from a small sect, then I must recruit him under my gum gene sect. My people are awakening were. How dare you try to peeks? Moi. What the fuck? It's a big cultivator. Hurry up and run. At that time, I wasn't able to take a clear look because a really strong cultivator stood in the way and pressured me. Now that I think about it, the one who triggered it was likely Lu Chauga. Not only did he get favored by the power of heaven and earth, he has someone looking after him. No wonder he was daring enough to reply saying, no wonder he dared to break my disciple's leg. I'm doomed. I'm really doomed. What's wrong with Master? Did he drink too much water? His brain can pee too? Nine times of heavenly order. That's really nine times of heavenly order. How can Gung Jin sect compare to him? They don't even have the right to polish his shoes. This ugly old man is in the way. But, with my elegance and charms, as long as I'm willing to pay the price, it shouldn't be hard to make a deal with Lu Chauga. Someone, gather all the elders and hold a meeting. We'll discuss how much resources to give in to M.O. Sect. Sect leader Yu didn't say something wrong, right? Given the resources to M.O. Sect? And even discussing how much? Shut up, all of you. 
Do as I say. Yes. Humph, all men are the same as expected. System notice. System notice? The young lord is still unparalleled for sure. MO sex reputation value, 501, new edition, gung jean sect ant chio shue sex fear. It increased to 500 already. Not bad at all. Seems like gung jean sect and chio shue sect have received my warning. MO sex reputation value, 502. How unfortunate. A small sect can only give such little reputation value. It only jumped this much after half a day. Capturing that two lambs and torturing them weren't worth that much. I have to think of other ideas to capture better praise. What's wrong? Are there flowers on my face? H.M.? Ah. In nothing. Young Lord, I was distracted. This girl, I just asked a random question, yet she got this flustered. Can't she be a little more honest and direct? Lu Chaogo was someone who could never understand the feelings and cautiousness of someone in a lower position. What he didn't understand even more was, to some people, they cherished their love like a thief. M.O. Sect, Dan Ching Mountain. Ha. Hey. Ha. I wonder what brother and that sinful disciple are up to now. If they dare to fool around, I'll rip them to shreds. Ah, uh, right. Brother went to the gathering of three sects to discuss the division of the land. As M.O. Sex Elder, I should care more about that gathering instead. Sigh, I wonder how's the discussion is going. Damn it, is this creature, called sister-in-law, is really not friendly at all to younger sisters. Master, am I circulating my aura correctly? Do it again. Master, I'm a genius, I can't possibly be wrong. How about... I stopped circulating. It's really exhausting to circulate aura. I said to just do it. Ah. It's obviously Master who got distracted. Why am I always the one to receive the hits? As expected of my closed-door disciple, how smart of her. It has only been a few days, but she has completely mastered the way to circulate aura. Phew. Not bad, not bad. You have potential. Master, seeing how well I circulate my aura, do you think I can accompany sect leader out on trips like second senior sister? Why are all of them trying to follow after him? Is Master angry? Oh, right, I also stuck to brother all the time when I was younger. I can't really blame them. Xiao Qiu, on normal circumstances, you're not allowed to go down the mountains. Huh? Why? Because you're my closed-door disciple. Master, why can't a closed-door disciple go down the mountains? Because there are no doors. Coming here to be a closed-door disciple means there are no doors, so a closed-door disciple means there are no doors who told you to pick up only the bad habits. If you have yet to become very skilled, so don't think of leaving and causing me trouble. Sigh, such a young child, am I being too mean? Let me comfort her a little. Master, I understand now. Is this what the sect master meant about living in seclusion? What else did he tell you? It's all right to go into seclusion. But what's important is to let the people in the world know of one thing in the future. W, what is it? When the dragon in slumber awakes, it'll rile up thousands of mountains. M, master? M, master, don't. Xiao Qiu, it's best if you just spend the rest of your life here with your master, rest of my life. Is brother back? H.M.? It's someone from the Sword Sect. Sword Sect. Sword Sect, as its name implies, is an extraordinary sect that plays dirty no, that utilizes swords. In an extraordinary sect like this, there are naturally levels. The disciples are divided into three categories, outer disciples, inner disciples, and direct disciples. Outer disciples bronze sword. Inner disciples silver swords. Direct disciples gold swords. 
However, what I don't understand is, why must they use silver swords? Silver Sword Disciple The one who suddenly appeared above M.O. Sect is a direct disciple, in other words, they are the direct disciples of one of the elders or even the sect leader of Sword Sect. He has a high status. This guy, he looks like he's in the second rank great completion on the surface. Well, even if he's in the beginning stage in the third rank, no, probably the middle stage. Since he's in the mid stage of third rank, then I can still win this. I'll test out his real strength first and hide my cultivation to the beginning stage of second rank. Let's see how he'll react. Why isn't that guy coming down? This guy, he's clearly using his sword's cry to call out, the sword sex direct disciple is here, why haven't you shown yourself to welcome him yet? This direct disciple of the sword sect is quite similar to my brother. But, when my brother is bragging, at least it makes me feel like he deserves to brag. But this guy's bragging makes me want to beat him up. Master, why is that person mimicking the sect leader? Darn it, Xiao Chiu really wants to beat him up. Ha ha ha, you think exactly like me. Ha ha ha, how could we be so rude towards a guest from the sword sect? Let us go and meet him first. HM? It seems like I won't have to go there myself now. Sword Sex Direct Disciple Chen Xiao, what's wrong with MO Sect? I've arrived for so long and even let out my sword cry already. Why hasn't anyone come to welcome me yet? I'm Yu Yu's the Direct Disciple of the Sword Sex Sword Sovereign is number one fan and close friend Chen Xiao. How dare they treat me so lightly? Humph, I won't give out their cultivation materials this time. I only came since I was passing by. But if they are so impolite, then don't think of blaming me. To think there is such a beautiful, snow lotus-like woman in this world? Looking at his clothes, it seems like he's from M.O. Sect. My trip here has not been wasted. Sigh. That person, how can he be so arrogant in such an astounding way? I understand now. It's that action. I've learned it. I've learned it now. Next time, I'll act that way too. She's looking at me. I have to hurry over and greet her, stating my identity as a sword sex direct disciple. I am a direct disciple of the sword sect, the disciple of the second elder in the sword sect, a cultivator who has reached second rank great completion Chen Xiao. Such an impressive title, I'm sure that young lady over there must look highly of me now. That M.O. Sect male disciple is probably too stunned from shock too, right? Oh. I, this is, this is. I was ignored. This treatment, how could I just hold it in? May I ask who you are? What's going on? I am the sect leader of M.O. Sect, Lu Chaoga. I? Merely the sect leader of a small sect, M.O. Sect from the lower hundred sects dares to claim to be superior in front of a direct disciple of the sword sect? I referred to myself in a humble way, yet he called himself I. He's implying that he's standing above me. Damn it, although I really wanted to learn from you, but you dare to act such crudely. Don't force me to use my sex reputation to pressure you. I have come under the orders of my sect. Is this how the M.O. sect treat their guests? Sect leader Lu, aren't you behaving too rudely? What did you call me? Sect leader Lu. Then, what is your identity? I am. A direct disciple of the sword sect. A direct disciple is still only a disciple. Is this disciple teaching me how to behave? This person, is he a fool? As the direct disciple of the sword sect, it is only a matter of time before I rise up as the sword sect's elder someday. Furthermore, direct disciples like me have a big chance of entering the fifth rank, great practitioner. Yet this guy, he's not even trying to suck up to me. This is bad. It has started again. Brother has started it again. 
This guy must have something up his sleeve if he's not sucking up to me. I must find out what it is. Divine Consciousness This brat wants to check my cultivation, huh? Go ahead then. First Rank Fifth Heavenly Layer Earlier on, this disciple used Divine Consciousness to check. Sect Leader Lu's cultivation is first rank, fifth heavenly layer, is that right? Oh, really? First rank, sixth heavenly layer. First rank, sixth heavenly layer. First rank, seventh heavenly layer. First rank, seventh heavenly layer. Now, what do you think of my strength? This guy, he hid his real cultivation, I can't see through him. Brother, has broken through again? As expected, brother is still the same. The brother that I always look up to. There's truly no one in the world who can compare to brother. This guy, Chen Xiao, was quite famous in my previous life. Because, from the start to the end, he was just plot fodder. He likes to brag too much, yet he was never good at pretending. It wasn't even cool when he was bragging. It only annoyed others and made them dislike him instead. He's you use number one kiss ass and lackey. And this lackey who liked bragging and running his mouth always caused troubles and had to depend on you to save him. This guy's characterization may be really messy, but he's always able to push the plot to progress. In other words, he's the typical lousy teammate that drags you down. And so, do I want to waste these hard-earned experience points I gathered for 20 years just to put someone like him in place? It's not worth it, not worth it. This Tianqian world is a game on how you manage your resources. I have to save up my experience points and use it on things like the sword intent at least. Forsaking a big bragging right for a small bragging right, it's not worth it for sure. If so, then this will be good enough. I should have shaken him down to his core already, it's easy to handle a character like him. Furthermore, this brat is here to send us money. He can leave, but his money has to stay. Follow behind me. Why yes, sect leader Lu. Huh, isn't that the leaf boat? That's the unique flying treasure tool that belongs to Elder Ning. Perhaps it's an imitation? But looking at it, it has to be a high quality imitation. Wait. Didn't senior brother Yu Yu and Elder Ning go down the mountain together? It can't be. It can't be, right? Could he be the mysterious senior brother that senior brother Yu Yu mentioned? My trip out of the mountains this time, aside from menial errands like distributing resources to lower sex, mysterious senior brother. There's another matter, which is to investigate the mysterious senior brother that senior brother you you mentioned. Senior brother you you personally told me that among the lower sex under the sword sect, there's someone whom he views as the rival of his entire lifetime, a mysterious senior brother who he labeled as the biggest rival or competitor in his life. But this type of discussion about this extraordinary senior brother had vanished several years ago. Senior brother Yu Yu never mentioned it ever again. But recently, after senior brother Yu Yu and Elder Ning came back from their trip, although I had formed my sword intent this time, that senior brother had succeeded in the same thing. He was even miles ahead of me. I have to work even harder. This mysterious senior brother who made senior brother Yu Yu who formed his sword intent to describe him as far ahead of me. The extraordinary mysterious senior brother has resurfaced in a more exaggerated way. That's the reason why I was rushing to investigate this matter. After pestering senior brother Yu Yu for a long time, I finally found out the general direction of this mysterious senior brother, which is the south area of Qingzhou, the Qinglong district. And the Qinglong district has nine of the upper hundred sects, not to mention the other sects. But this is really obvious. It's very likely it's that guy. It's highly possible. No matter what, I have to get to the bottom of this as long as I can find the mysterious senior brother so that from now onwards, I'll be someone who shares the same little secret as senior brother Yu Yu. He he just the thought of sharing a secret with senior brother Yu Yu makes me a little excited. Why is that person always staring at the young lords, but... Young lord, that person is using a really weird way to look at your backside. Let me cover you a little. If that lowly thing dares to act recklessly, I'll mince him into pieces. D do you mean? 
Shut your mouth. If you say another word, I'll kick you out of the sect. How can I think of something so weird like that? After all, the young lord's body is something I've secretly peeked at for so many years. No one can think of stealing it away. You. Moss. Tur. It seems like it's not the time for us to meet yet. Since you've appeared in this district, I'm sure our paths will cross one day. Master, I'm betting it will be the head that lands first. I agree. Ah. Uh. Yay. See, can someone help me? Gung Jean Sect Elders Meeting. All of you have been evading this matter, but there's no decision until now yet. How much are we really giving in to M.O. Sect? However, I do have quite a plan. While giving him our resources to get on his good side, it won't let us lose too much either. Hurry up and say it. Such a great plan. Why are you still hiding it? Let's sacrifice a little on our side and personally send some good-looking disciples over to them. What do you think? Are you serious? If you are, then die on your own. Don't drag us along, thanks. That's basically the situation. But well, men. There's no man who can't be dealt with by using the body. If there is, then we'll use two bodies. Then who are we choosing? An intimate task of utmost importance like this definitely requires a woman who is both refined inside and outside. Actually, I can volunteer. I'm really confident in the aspect of deepening intimacy. Besides, I have met him before. This damned girl, has she never thought of giving the sect leader, me, the chance? Such a dependable backing, she's trying to take it for herself? This is an act of deceiving her master and causing the downfall of our ancestors. Master will definitely choose me, right? Come. Let the storm rain on me and my body. Eh? A flying sword message. Seeing the look of that sword, it has to be one of the intimate friends that Master has, the elder from one of the middle hundred sects. However, why is a message sent at this time? Great, great. This came at a great time. My efforts on forming a friendship with him is not wasted. Hurry, we'll go discuss this matter with Gung Jin sect sect leader. A disciple from the sword sect, furthermore it's the direct disciple of the second elder, dropping by our sect for fun. This clearly shows that a great opportunity has come to us. A great opportunity has come to us. Attention, everyone. The matter of giving out our resources to M.O. Sect will be set aside for now. Go and look for this direct disciple from the sword sect right away. No matter what tricks you have to use, find him at all costs. All of you, go look for him. No matter what, you have to become intimate friends with him. You are allowed to be forceful only under special circumstances. Yes, Master. The chance to rise has come. The direct disciple of the sword sect, if I made someone like that my husband, wouldn't that mean I'd rise up in success? I could be the elder's wife in the future. Fufu. I'm getting a little excited just imagining it. Fellow sisters, there is only one of him out there, and it's first come first served. You can't say for sure. No men won't be tempted by melons. Humph, as long as you're skilled, anything would work. As long as I work hard, he'll always have to lean on the wall for support when he leaves home. Humph. We haven't found him yet and you're already spouting nonsense. Do they really think men are that shallow? Once I've found him, I'll ask to be sworn brothers first. Haven't you heard of the saying that women are like clothes, but brothers are like your hands and feet? Really? We won't mind having a deep exchange with any brothers who come over now. Me, me, me. You guys. While the Gung Jin sect and Chiu Shui sect were in a mess, there was also an undercurrent at M.O. sect. Welcome back to the sect, brother. Welcome back to the sect, sect leader. Ugh. How dare you, M.O. sect.
This is not a complete sentence. It appears to be part of a longer text. Without context, it is difficult to translate accurately. To think that you have two beautiful female cultivators at such a high level, and they both revolve around that guy. Not right, not right. I am the number one in the world of Sword Sect, and also the second elder and disciple of the Sword Sect, the future of Sword Sect, and the dear friend of the top person in Sword Sect. Why do I envy such a small M.O. man? Humph, a mere M.O. man, I as the leader cannot see through them, but these disciples. How is it possible that I couldn't see? Two realms, nine ninefold heavens, two realms, nine ninefold heavens, that is the attainment of great perfection. How is this possible? At such a young age, he has even stronger abilities compared to mine, even in the sword sect, he is only a junior disciple, this M.O. gate. This M.O. man is truly a hidden dragon and crouching tiger. Not bad, little pair. You even know how to flatter your brother. Go to the main hall, yes. This is the best time to subdue Chen Xiao. Strike while the iron is hot. Maximize the B level directly. After all, is this the money Chen Xiao brought back? I haven't received it yet, right? Please, what can those mere disciples of the sword sect compare to my older brother? The architecture of this M.O. gate is even more grand compared to several other Chinese gates I have passed by before. Is this Chaoga Road really the mysterious senior brother mentioned by senior brother Yu Yu? Take your seats, everyone. She'll be the one to pour tea for me? Such a close distance, I should be able to smell her scent, right? MHM it really is. Why can't I smell her scent? Huh? Two meter distance. Is there really a need to keep such a distance? Won't you leave that guy with a trauma? Seeing your sister's pouring tea posture is so weird, I want to learn it. That lady appears as pure as jade, I suppose that's how she treats other men too, right? I shouldn't overthink it. Young lord, enjoy your tea. Could it be my identity as the direct disciple of the sword sect, the disciple of the second elder of the sword sect, the future pillar of the sword sects, is so insignificant? Cough, cough. Is your throat not feeling well, sect leader Lu? What's wrong with this guy? Why isn't he giving me the money yet? Hurry up and send me the money. Get lost, do I have to keep you for a meal? Senior brother, are you here at my moment sect for a specific matter? There is indeed a real matter. That girl called me senior brother. This is my chance to showcase myself. I have to seize it. Chief Lu, I am here this time to distribute cultivation resources to the subordinate sects of the sword sect, belonging to the moment. I am also ready. This belongs to the M.O. clan. Inside there are spirit stones, spirit medicines, and equipment for refining. Material for refining. It's great that it was refined from Ant Ning for free. Good. The power of heaven and earth. He actually had a spiritual awakening. Steady now. This person is most likely mysterious senior brother. I'm rich. I'm rich. Well, this item shall be accepted by this seat. Additionally, this disciple here, you previously mentioned to this seat that you are still carrying a task assigned by your sect? The allocation of resources is a benefit for subordinate sects, while collaborating with disciples of the sword sect to carry out missions is the responsibility of subordinate sections. Yes, my task for this trip is to go down the mountain. IT is because the demon cultivator has passed through. Passing through the demon repair. Where are you? If others were to hear about it, they would be afraid to avoid it, only he. Just one question, where? We, cultivators of the sword, fear no battle. This is the very spirit we seek. Demon cultivators are not monsters that have cultivated into a higher being. Instead, they are actually human cultivators who forcefully injected deviant beasts' blood into their blood. As their blood was mixed with deviant beasts' blood, they became stronger but also desired blood and human flesh. Why do I look weirder and weirder? 
It is also known as demonic cultivation. Forget it, forget it. This world is like this. Am I really related to this thing? The strongest factor within demon cultivators is that they can control the deviant beasts whom they are connected by blood. It can multiply their strength. So where's my fish? As for the deviant beasts, they are different from the demon race in the Tianxian world. They do not have much intellect, but they like blood and fighting. Especially great at eating rice. No, I mean eating humans. Deviant beasts depend on consuming others to grow stronger. So wherever a demon cultivator go, it will surely lead to devastation. Therefore, the demon cultivators among the cultivation world is widely known as unparalleled among their ranks. Unless there is a higher rank genius cultivator, most people is not brave enough to face them. Because this group of beings were not just strong, they can grow stronger just by eating. They could rank up any time, which meant digging your own grave. As for the demon race, they are different from the demon race that cultivated to extreme lengths nor finally became immortal mounts. There is not enough space so we won't mention it for now. Therefore, all the cultivation sects would tell their disciples, if you meet a demon cultivator of the same rank, run. Don't offer your heads and nurture them further. Sect Leader Lu, according to the information given by the sword sect, this demon cultivator is at second rank. Quite a number of deviant beasts follow it too. How weak, it's not that one. Why does he look a little disappointed? I wonder if this demon cultivator can let me acquire information about that guy. Disciple, if you need any help from me, feel free to ask. However, I still have to go. Why does it feel strange, whatever? We've discovered the tracks of the demon cultivator. I hope sect leader Lu can accompany me to check it out. If I bring him along, I can take a look at his real strength. And if he truly is strong, then he must be that mysterious senior brother. If he's not strong, then allow this sword sect direct disciple who broke through the second rank to finish off the demonic being. I can gain back my dignity in front of him. Hey, as expected of me, killing two birds with one stone. You have triggered the mission, Demon Cultivator's appearance. Do you want to accept it? Reward, 50,000 EXP and one yellow ranked item repair voucher. As I expected, I can trigger the mission. Mission accepted. Disciple, I agree to your request. Tomorrow, I shall accompany you to kill that demon cultivator. Yes, sect leader Lu. Hold it in, Chen Xiao. Damn it. This guy really speaks so arrogantly. The mountains are for immortals. As for this place, it's run by M.O. Sect. Humph, if you want to cause a ruckus, then ask the sword in my hands first, whether or not I will allow it. Brother, I forgot to ask you before. How did the gathering of the three sects go? Inferior disciple, seeing me act intimate with my brother, yet she won't hurry up and leave. Luo Bing, let your master know about it. Okay, sect leader. It went down like this. Sect leader used a charming stance to stun the Chiu Shui sect and Gung Jin sect, as well as showing off the true strength of the M.O. sect in front of them. It was truly like an immortal had descended to the mortal world, a true god he is. Hmm. That mouth of hers is truly amazing. I feel really refreshed. It's the 1875th prediction, Chiu Shui sect and Gung Jin sect. Elder Dongli, what are you mumbling over there? Ah, nothing. In the thousands of estimates, I've determined that the Chiu Shui sect and Gung Jin sect won't possibly come over to cause any trouble anymore. I shouldn't need to worry, however. Brother, the trip down to get rid of the demon cultivator tomorrow, can I tag along? Demon cultivators are strong. I'm worried about brother. This Brett, she's worried about me. Why isn't brother saying anything? Will he not agree to it? If he dares to disagree, I will pull on his ears. Suit yourself. With Donnelly's personality, there's no use snatching a monster from her. Yay! If I really can't beat Chen Xiao, I can still use her as my secret last resort. At such a time, it sure is nice to have a younger sister. 
both the young lord and master are facing the dangers head on. How could I sit still? Sect leader, master, I want to. Not allowed. Don't think about it. I haven't finished talking. I said it's not allowed. You clearly want to cling to my brother again. Don't go this time. Demon cultivators are far scarier than you can imagine. With your current cultivation, you might not be able to help and even likely would become a burden. Work hard on cultivating and catch up first. I forgot. It's because young lord hasn't broken through for so long that I managed to catch up to him, but now he could break through again. Plus, he broke through so fast. He's so fast, too fast, too abnormally fast. If the gap between our cultivation becomes bigger, then, perhaps at that time it would really be like what Master said, not only being unable to help up, I too could end up becoming a burden too. I have to work hard. I want to stand beside Young Lord, I want to. Become someone the Young Lord needs. Experience points plus 999, experience points plus 999, experience points plus 999. Other people's cultivation requires money, resources, or even go mad while they're cultivating, but I truly am different. It's causing my death. This pain meditation is truly merciless. Just meditating a second more made me bleed profusely. The spirit I gave offerings to at the graveyard? Is there anything? What's wrong? If you want blood essence, I can't give it now. Chen Zhao's house? Kill him? That's a bit. Not killing him? I see. You're referring to the demon cultivator. What do you want from that demon cultivator for? You want the corpse? Please do not doubt how Lu Chaogam managed to guess it's the corpse just by pointing at himself. The backstories are always very terrifying. So, you want a complete one, or? You don't want the head, alright. You know this as well, but demon cultivators are really strong. Even if it's me facing them, I'll have to use my full strength. Under such circumstances, requesting for me to only behead him. There'll be added charges. What? Pretending to malfunction again? If you won't add on extra charges this time, I... Give it to me. You'll only give me the Jade Scroll when you see the corpse, huh? You might not be smart. But you sure aren't dumb. Autumn Cicada Sword Skill, Blue Rank, Lower Tier, Blue Rank, Lower Tier. It's a secret sword skill that can only have in middle ranked sex. This scroll's value far exceeds the life of a demon cultivator in the second rank. It seems like it is true that having an elderly at home is like having a treasure. This task, I'm taking it for sure. Additionally, there's the system's reward for this mission too. Isn't this killing three birds with one stone? Blue ranked sword skill, I'm looking forward to it. In my past life, I spent a huge amount and only acquired a blue rank middle tier scaled dragon entering the sea. Scaled dragon entering the sea, the core of that shooting skill is it shoots out like a dragon and every shot packs a punch. I wonder if this autumn cicada would mean bringing forth the autumn with a slash as it rains down with cicadas? Alright, taking consideration of our relationship, I'll accept this job. Definitely not because of that blue ranked sword skill, of course. I wonder what other treasures it still has. I have to think of more ways to acquire them. Speaking of which, what do you want the demon cultivator's corpse for? Are you pretending to be deaf the second you achieved your goal? Really now? Who would have thought that one day I would be used like a tool too? Lu Chauga, it's time for you to be on your way. Speaking so condescendingly to me this early in the morning, do you really want your brother to be on his way to death? He he. 
I just wanted to experience being the villain for a bit. All right, I'm done preparing as well. How about you? Everything's ready. Items used for sleeping, brushing teeth and washing up, secret weapons for enemies and escape puppets are all prepared. My younger sister is too dependable. What shall I do? He 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 hurry up and call for that sword sect disciple so we can set off together. Okay. That disciple, come and gather in front of the mountain entrance. Gather in front of the mountain entrance. Gather in front. Gather. 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 My name is Chen Xiao. I'm not called that disciple. I almost forgot that our MO sect used to have a protection array as well. Just that it's a little old and in need of repairs. Brother, don't worry. I'm already in the midst of learning about arrays. Someday, I'll restore this ink painting protection array. I almost forgot as well that my younger sister may not have acquired level 10 for every attribute stats, but she has reached level 9 for all of them. She can learn anything very easily. Unfortunately, we're too poor. I can't acquire any materials for her to practice with. Although I know your motive behind repairing it is to play around more freely after that, but it still makes me happy to hear that. I'll find a way to get some money for you. Since it's an older brother's responsibility to fulfill his younger sister's wishes. Brother, if only the new players would arrive sooner, that would be great, since... New players are the best tools to be taken advantage of and are also great workers. Sect Leader Lu, let me repeat it once again. My name is Chen. The sense that Disciple has arrived, let us set out. Yes, Sect Leader. Humph. Setting out without me wouldn't work. How would you know where the Demon Cultivator is at? Watch closely. I'm going to track down the Demon Cultivator. This is it. A blood tool, mainly used in tracking the owner of the blood. Stop talking and get on with it already. There's nothing I don't know of. Damn it. He's embarrassing me every single chance he gets. Humph, I have to find a way to redeem myself. Brother, how do you know that? We don't have such a thing in M.O. Sect. It's my first time seeing the real thing too, but I've seen it in a live stream, a ham, under special circumstances, I've seen some special people use it with special uses before. Special, special? Special what? There's a reaction. We're not far from the owner of the blood. This tool is vibrating really fast now, let's hurry. Brother, what other special use does that thing have? Damn it, I accidentally said too much just now. This is bad. I can't taint a child. Crush garlic, of course. Look at that item. How suitable it is to crush garlic into paste. I see. It's vibrating so much that I can hardly hold it in anymore. It should be around here. Forest of Flames? Brother's marrow cleansing grass was also acquired from here after killing a deviant beast. Brother, this forest of flames has many beasts hidden. If that demon cultivator is here, his strength must be even stronger than them. How about we? Let's go down then. Demon cultivator, right? I'll let it have a taste of how a broken skull feels like from a master player. As expected, brother isn't afraid at all. The forest of flames reeks of the trace of beasts. If we were to fight with the demon cultivator here, it will be a great danger. Since there are many beasts that can be controlled here, once the fight breaks out, we'll likely be surrounded by many beasts. That sect leader Lu, what is he thinking now? Let's go down then. Demon cultivator, right? I'll let it have a taste of how a broken skull feels like from a master player. Why does he look so excited? I understand now, as a sword cultivator, I should be just as fearless too. Sect leader Lu is truly remarkable. It's filled with deviant beasts and that demon cultivator is down there. Isn't this a great spot to gain experience? A real man should be fearless for the sake of experience points. He he he. 
Demon cultivator, beasts, you have all been surrounded by me. The blood tool is vibrating violently. The demon cultivator must be right in front. Let's hurry. Lead the way. Leading the way is fine, but I'll let you see my real strength later. Damn it. Even sect leaders from the middle-ranked sects wouldn't dare to order me around like this. A mere sect leader from the lower-ranked sect, how dare he? We're really close. Be careful. I suddenly kinda want to see, if I use that tool to get the demonic cultivator's neck, would it fly from the vibrations? But what a waste. If M.O. Sect has a tool like that, maybe I could have tracked down the demon cultivator that killed my parents. Deviant beasts consume each other even if they're the same kind. It's not easy to complete the task given by the ancestor, since those deviant beasts don't just eat up the brains. They usually eat up an entire corpse with no scraps left. Let's hide our chi aura first. I know how to use that technique too, but not as effortlessly as her. Since we've hidden our chi aura, let's get closer and launch a sneak. Don't go. What are you doing? I'm launching a sneak attack. We can win if we do this. Why are you stopping me? Because we're already exposed. Level 21 Deviant Beast Black Winged Dog, Level 25 Deviant Beast Scorpion Tiger, The Deviant Beasts. So what? Cut them down. Roar your ass. I'm going to smash open your dog head. As a sword cultivator, is this what I amount to? What kind of cultivator am I if I'm afraid now? Sect leader lose back. I'll guard it. This brat, he barely passes. Beast black winged dog, now I can cut you down without any worries. Deviant beast black winged dog. Humph. Seeing how sect leader Lu is doing, I, as the direct disciple of sword sect, the disciple of the second elder of sword sect and you use close friend, can't possibly lag behind too. That brat. Is actually an idiot? It seems like I won't deal much damage to it without using sword intent. Besides, the demon cultivator is still hiding in the dark. It's obviously planning to launch a sneak attack. If so, I won't hold back anymore either. Brother finally used his sword intent. He should have done this earlier. Even if it's against an ant, he should thread with caution. And he should use his strongest skills too. The legends on killing an ant with nuclear bomb are about you, right? T that is. Sword intent, a sword intent that has a form. He has to be the mysterious senior brother. He must be. Definitely. At this age, even senior brother you use sword intent has only just taken its form. Yet he must be a true genius, no, a devil incarnate. He must be one. Only someone like him can be considered as the peerless sword user, the rival of Senior Brother Yu Yu. Oh, right, Senior Brother Yu Yu, he's also a peerless sword user. He definitely is the peerless sword user too. To think there are two peerless sword users in one generation. Doesn't this mean? My sword skill will blossom soon too? This human suddenly stopped trying to cut me down and is being an idiot over there. Isn't this a good chance for me to attack? If I don't bite him now, when is a better time? Oh no. A level 30 getting pushed around by a level 25? He sure is sheltered too well by the sword sect. Watch closely what a man who's tempered in blood looks like. The disciple from the sword sect, you should never let your guard down in front of your enemies. Thank you for enlightening me, sect leader Lu. It looks like this brat has been more or less bought over already. It's here. Level 27 Demon Cultivator Lu Ling. Level 26 Deviant Beast Iron Rhinoceros, a mere first-ranked cultivator dared to try and kill my pet dog in front of me? 
truly arrogant. Know your own limits. Go. You will grow a far better pair of wings if you eat him. Deviant Beast Black Winged Dog. As for you, the direct disciple of the sword sect. You're my real target. Are you guys looking down at sect leader Lu? A trash who has yet to enter the second rank, why is there a need for me to take him seriously? Sect leader Lu isn't an existence that can be measured by the likes of you. The second best boaster in Tian Xian world has officially appeared. That brat, he's been completely influenced by brother, right? A fly? I'll use that skill then, even though it'll empty my mana. Ink Splash How can this be, my black dog, it's a second rank. I've said so earlier already, sect leader Louis will definitely be the top two in the world one day. Because the top one will be senior brother Yu Yu. You have successfully killed the black winged dog beast and gained 20,000 experience points as reward. Level 17. Nice. 20,000 for a dog when leveling up once requires 18,000 experience points. This is a great chance to level up. Level up 18. For the feeling of full HP and full mana, how great. Sect leader Lu has broken through again. Brother has broken through again. But it's been too frequent lately. If this keeps on happening, won't I be able to stay behind my brother's back forever? Eh, -he, staying together with my brother forever. Ah. Why? Why must there be a creature called sister-in-law? Why did sect leader Louis open up his rank boundary to the eighth heavenly layer now? I understand. Sect leader Lu wants to defeat the demon cultivator in that rank. Suppressing his cultivation in a fight, this might just be his way of training himself. He he he. Although I don't know why you said he was top two, but right here right now, I'll let you two become a part of me. I'll get rid of him first and it'll be your turn next. Hey. The ugly person hiding in a cloak over there who's too scared to show your face to others. Who are you calling ugly? Don't sweat the details. Now come, ugly. Kill me off, this weak fly who doesn't know his own limits. Kill him. Iron Rhinoceros. These beasts of yours have no rights to approach sect leader Lu. I used up all my spiritual energy with that one skill, but fortunately I managed to direct all my cold sweat to my back at the very last moment, or else it'd be a waste of this skill. Did that brat use spiritual energy to hide his sweat on his back so my brother doesn't see it? He's exactly the same as brother who secretly used spiritual wind technique. This brat. He has picked up on the essence. Iron Rhinoceros. How can you be defeated now? Didn't you promise you'd go to the peak of demonic cultivation with me? Are you breaking your promise? Iron Rhinoceros, rest in peace. I'll definitely exact revenge for you. This is bad. That guy is trying to acquire the demonic crystal. It's the mutual consumption of demonic beasts. Once I've killed those two, I'll use the blood of an entire village as offering into you. Become part of me now and continue to live on. Eating the corpse while crying and mourning over it. The world of demonic cultivation sure is wild. Brother. His ability to control power has grown stronger. Lusek leader can even grab onto things from afar. As expected of him. Return it to me. That's mine. What are you saying? In a moment, your body will belong to me as well. Since the ancestor wants it. Cease your weird thoughts right now. Fine. You're the one who forced me. All the beasts in Forest of Flames, awaken. This is bad. All the beasts in this forest have been awakened. If we don't stop him, we'll be facing all of them. 15, no, 18. 19. The number is still increasing. 
Brother, when a sudden situation occurs, I can't hide my power any longer. Brother's life is more important than anything else. Fear me. This is the greatness of a demon cultivator. After I've killed you guys, I'll order these beasts to consume all the villages in this land. Shit, both of my hands are controlling the beasts. I can't free up any. Did you forget that the you now has not a single beast that can protect you anymore? You, you, L, let me go just once. I won't show up anymore, I swear. I definitely won't show up anymore. I won't harm a single person. Anymore? But that incident has become a hopeless memory of mine. A child who had been orphaned and the lives that were already lost. They don't have a future anymore. That was close. I almost pulled out my sword. Just now, why did I sense a great strength that's on par with my master? Ah. Could it be? Sect leader Lu's identity is special, so there's a cultivator guarding him in the shadows? That's not right. Sect leader Lu is so strong. Why would he need someone's protection? Ah. I know. He's actually worried about us. Sect leader Lu, who acted like he didn't care about the people around him, specially arranged a cultivator to protect my safety in secret so that deviant beasts can't sneak up on me. What's wrong with that guy? Did he turn stupid from the shock? Sword sex direct discipline, is he silly? You have finished the mission. Killing the demonic beast, will you collect the rewards? Yes. Cheng Xiao is just a tool, so this time it counts as a solo kill. The experience points are unbelievably high. Plus 50,000 experience points, plus 35,000 experience points, yellow rank treasure item voucher X1. I can exchange another reward with the body. The item storing ring is likely to have a bunch of things as well. Besides, are there any other valuable things on the demonic beast's body? Special mission item if you can gather two of them, it will unlock a hidden plot and allow you to accept a hidden mission. Cough, Don Lee clean up the battlefield, including the corpses too. Understood, sect leader. This item can unlock a hidden mission? The hidden missions in my previous life never had something like this. Is there some sort of special triggering method? Sect Leader Lu. This time, it's really thanks to you. It's just a small matter. No need to bring it up. Hurry up and scram. Are you planning on staying over for dinner? Just leave after the mission. Sect Leader Lu, that demonic beast's corpse, I... You can take the head to report back. I have plans for the other parts. I can't let you take everything back. All right. Please let me take the head of this demonic beast and that will suffice. This brat, he's understanding. If not for sect leader Lu, I wouldn't be able to kill it at all, let alone complete the mission. Furthermore, he's the mysterious senior brother that senior brother you, you mentioned. From today onwards, this is a secret between Senior Brother Yu Yu and me. He he he, then wouldn't I be the person who understands Senior Brother Yu Yu the most? I'm kinda excited from imagining that. That disciple who's grinning like an idiot. Here. This head is for you. You may leave on your own now. No, 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 Sect Leader Lu. I still have a lot I want to learn from you. Furthermore, I have some doubts I want to ask. We'll talk on the way. I'd like to ask. Sect Leader Lu, why did you refuse to unsheathe your real sword from the start till the end? Because he's not worthy of it. He was not worthy. He was not worthy. Is this how Sect Leader Lu carries himself? My generation of cultivators should be like this. When that guy showed up, I thought his path would be narrow but he ended up widening it again now. Great, yet another person who has completely been influenced. But as long as brother is safe, it's fine then. Longevity, please continue to protect my brother with me. Since your name was the majestic white jade capital in the heavens, twelve towers W and five cities, the gods touched my head, gently bonded my hair, and granted longevity.
The gods touched my head gently, bonded my hair, and granted longevity. Was given by brother. What a wonderful name, longevity. It means to have a long life with brother. That is, the people from Gung Jin sect and Chiu Shui sect. That's a direct disciple from the sword sect. We've never met a direct disciple from the sword sect despite searching far and wide on this land. Why is he standing behind sect leader Lu? We were careless. This Lu Chao Ge's background is stronger than any of us imagined. What is it, everyone? Sect leader Lu. Ha ha ha. Isn't this about the distribution of resources that happens once a decade? Our three sects live on the same land. It's easier for all of us to distribute it among ourselves. This Lu Chao Ge, how is he this good looking? No wonder these girls were so forward in attacking this sect leader Lu. They wanted him for themselves. Shen Qing Qing may be my beloved disciple, but she still has a long way to go. Such a lowly job shouldn't be given to young people like her. I'll do it myself. Sect leader Lu, about the resources this time, we're willing to offer. So it's about the distribution of resources. I've done a lot of these in sword sect, so I'm really experienced. Sect leader Lu, how about letting me handle this? Sure. This tool is getting more and more useful. Sect leader Lu actually patted my shoulder. Is that a sign of him acknowledging me? Great job, tool guy. From now on, if I have a bowl of rice to eat, you'll have a bowl to wash. Good luck. Let's go Elder Dong Li Sect Leader Lu. Sect Leader Lin, right? Here, please follow me this way. Eh, all right. This is bad. I can't even come close to him. How will I even do anything intimate with him? If I do well in the distribution of resources this time, won't my relationship with sect leader Lu grow even deeper? If I have a deeper relationship with sect leader Lu, doesn't that mean I have more topics to talk about with senior brother Yu Yu? I'm one step closer to becoming senior brother Yu Yu's best friend. Perfect. Chen Xiao did not disappoint Chao Ge's expectations and got a large share of the resources for them. After that, when nighttime came, Lu Chao Ge went ahead to acquire his second reward. I'm here. I've brought the corpse too. He he he. Give it here. This autumn cicada is better off past to Xiao Li Zi. If I learned it, there would be no more, but if she learned it, she can teach it to disciples as well as me, truly a human photocopier. Furthermore, this can be counted as MO sex asset too. But managing matters relating to the sex assets, shouldn't that be the responsibility of the sect leader's wife? It will be difficult to make Xiao Li Zi hand over this authority. Speaking of which, why did you want this corpse for? Here, since you're one of us, I'll let you take a look at this. This thing, you know it? This is Purple Moon Badge. Purple Moon Badge. It's the Purple Moon Association related to the demon beast who killed my parents. This is an item from the Purple Moon Association. Then, the demon cultivator killed is one of the Purple Moon Association's members? No? What you're saying is that one needs to have two of these to be counted as an official member. So that's how it is with just one badge, you'll be considered as a backup member. The more Purple Moon badges you have, your status and strength would be higher too. Are you familiar with this Purple Moon Association? Then there's a chance to investigate that guy further. Sigh, it's malfunctioning, even though I know her mind is unstable, to think I tried depending on her to seek out my enemy for revenge. I'm the idiot here. But, the me in the previous life did know quite a bit about the Purple Moon Association I still remember, that one guild who would always be zealously fighting in front of me, they are also hunting down the Purple Moon Association. That guild is well known to be a rich guild, and every member took pride in money and shame in having O credit, so every single one of them was formidable. 
but the me from then was on par with their entire guild. They were all defeated by me in the end. I remember I once told them, don't use your whole family's assets to challenge my allowance. It stunned everyone there as I was unmatched under the heavens. Are you forgetting the main point here? What about the Purple Moon Association? Sigh. That's all I remember about the Purple Moon Association from the past. Did you think I wouldn't want to recall more? So, this is actually what you wanted? I can give it to you, but I might need this item in the future so by then you will need to lend it to me. What's good about that thing? Speaking of which, do you know where else I can get my hands on the Purple Moon Badge? To unlock the hidden mission, I will need two Purple Moon Badges after all. It'd be great if there are clues to it. Why are you looking at me? Are you the same as me, seeking revenge with the Purple Moon Association? You've lost your memory. I understand now. You realized you have a large amount of Purple Moon badges, so you want me to help you find back your lost memories? Fortunately, I can understand you, or else, I would even guess you're the leader behind the Purple Moon Association and was distributing these badges out in large amounts. If the system never labeled you with a red name, I might have really guessed wrongly. No worries. My parents' deaths have nothing to do with you. I know you have limitations placed on your body and couldn't save them. I'll help you take note of any news regarding the Purple Moon Association. Helping you equals helping myself too. Hey. I'll help you to take note of news regarding the Purple Moon Association, but you have to lend a few more of those badges for me. I need them. What it's saying is, it was clearly me who asked you to bring back the corpse for me, so that I can check if the demon cultivator had any of the badges, how did it turn out with me not having the badge and even having to give you a few of mine? I'm not lying to you. Just lend a few to me. I really have a way of acquiring useful news, and I'll let you know at that time. It seems like she may be stupid, but it's not without any limits. What it means now, how many do you need, just take it then. Two will be enough. You have fulfilled the hidden plots requirement, will you investigate IL further? Yes. Quite an impressive front system. Is the message you're giving this time so powerful? That's it? Purple Moon Association, a mysterious demonic cultivation association. There are many members in this association. It's one of the three biggest demonic cultivation groups. This association mostly roams around Qingzhou, as if they are planning something. Purple Moon members have a passionate and deep respect for the Purple Moon Association. They believe that once they have consumed the Purple Moon, they can acquire boundless power. That's it? There's nothing else? This is it? Seems like I can only depend on my own analysis. Purple Moon, it must symbolize something that once consumed will become stronger. It does fit the demonic cultivator's style. They admire it yet want to consume it. Are they a bunch of tsunderers? If you want to unlock more hidden plots, it will require 10 Purple Moon badges. So that two badges are only the entrance fees. It's like a bar. If you want to have fun, you need to spend more money. Or else you can only watch from the sidelines. What it's trying to say, why are you taking that many? Look at how stingy you are. When I gave you my blood essence, did you see me haggling with you? Once I've succeeded, I'll definitely not be as stingy as you are. I will definitely share what I have. You have reached the requirements. Do you wish to read it? Yes. The Purple Moon Association will conduct a small gathering among their members in Qingzhou every three years. The next time will be during Dongji next year. You will receive one of the location coordinates. Please pay attention. Dongji next year. Seems like these demonic cultivators are all noob players. An opportunity has come for me. I have to grow with the remaining time I have. It's getting closer to those new players joining in. When that time comes, hold your hands up. 
Put them behind your heads and squat down. He he he, where did this soft-skinned, supple flesh come from? I want to play with his skin before I eat him. He really looks so handsome. Don't you dare. Anyone who's handsomer than me has to die. If I'm not strong enough and rusting like a little trash, I'll be serving myself on a plate. I almost forgot about her. I still need to reveal some secrets to get off the hook. This skill of mine was learned from Kong E. G.'s platoon technique. Even a blind fortune teller would let out a praise. I've calculated it. Humph. Heaven's secrets must not be divulged. What it's saying is, scram, scram, scram. Stop pushing me, stop pushing me. It's not that I don't want to tell you, but I have to collect my thoughts first. Once I've thought it over, I'll tell you the details, okay? I'll be leaving first then. Actually, Lu Chaoga did not understand what it was trying to say this time. This place is a little far. But, the road to killing is never too far. Dongji next year is still far away. Dongji this year is nearing instead. It's little Lizzie's birthday again. Dongji. With this pace of training, once I've gotten used to feeling pain, won't I be more resistant to being hit in the future? No sensation of pain, it feels unparalleled just thinking about it. He, at that time, I. Brother. Dongli. It's another year of Dongji. Our little Lizzie is now another year older. This sentence was originally what our father used to say, but now it's me instead. You're going down the mountains wearing this little? Donley might become Donley later. Of course, I'll wear more on. Who do you think am I? Since all the preparations have been made, let's get going. This year's Mortal Transforming Day should be experienced well. Mortal Transforming Day is when cultivators seal all their cultivation to experience the life of a mortal. The Lu family decided this day to be on Dong Li's birthday. As for Chaoga's birthday, skipped over. Because he's not one who likes celebrating birthdays. Chao Li District M.O. Sex Estate. Tui, Tui. The dust layer is so thick. It hasn't been inhabited for a year, of course it would be. We can only clean it up slowly. Don Lee, don't move. Your nose is all covered in dust, yet you can't tell? Mm -hmm. Puff. I'm going to kill you. Someone's killing her own brother. Don't be mad anymore, the noodles are almost ready. It smells great, I can't control myself. If father was still alive, he would definitely say, the hustle and bustle of the world is the most comforting to mortals' hearts. He will definitely continue it with, no matter how noble your dreams are, you will ultimately return to the simplicity of life. Sigh. Here, I bought this for you when I was on my way to buy some salt. Thanks, brother, he. It was actually not on the way, but I still wanted to buy it for you. I almost forgot that little Lizzie is all grown up now. If I pat her head again, she will get mad. Hmm, he. It's delicious. The hustle and bustle of the world is the most comforting to mortals' hearts. No matter how noble your dreams are, you will ultimately return to the simplicity of life. You're always stealing my thunder. Ha ha, doesn't he resemble you? He, you have no choice since I'm your son, he. My egg. He, eat your noodles, quickly. Oh, mother gave this to me. Go away. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Hmm. How about pinching her cheeks a little? Pinch a little, poke a little, pinch a little. Poke a little. But Don Lee is an adult now. I have to think about her feelings too. 
Domli. H.M., brother. Happy birthday. Yeah, thank you, brother. Dongji next year won't be as peaceful as this year's. I'll definitely take revenge for our parents. The next day on the way back home. Little Lizzy, accompany me to a place in Dongji next year. Where? I'm not going if it's too far away. I just want to stay on M06 Danching Mountain, cultivating further. I'll bring you to kill. Okay. We might not survive it this time. Are you scared, Little Lizzy? I'm not afraid since brother's here. Then we have to hurry up. There are many things we need to do. We have to increase our strength and expand our sect. There will be a new wave of disciples coming soon. There are 250 days remaining to Tianxian World's beta testing. Players will soon log in the game and enter Tianxian World. You don't know where sect leader Lu went? I feel like I've completely been forgotten. I don't know either. If I knew where he is, I wouldn't be wasting my time here with you. This girl, her entire mind is filled with sect leader Lu, Sai, but I guess I'm not completely lost either. Who knows where sect leader Lu went to? I just needed to confirm one last thing with him to 100% make sure he's the mysterious senior brother. Sect leader Lu. Oh damn, I didn't wait for nothing. This is my chance. Sect leader Lu, I'm here to say my farewells. Okay, I got it. Leave quickly then. This doesn't feel right. Sect Leader Lu, do you need me to greet Elder Ning and Senior Brother Yu Yu for you? As long as he answers, as long as he admits to knowing Elder Ning and Senior Brother Yu Yu, then it must be him. The legendary mysterious Senior Brother, the one more talented than even Senior Brother Yu Yu. This kid, he's testing me. Now that M.O. Sex reputation value is stuck, exposing a little to him and gaining some from the Sword Sect isn't a bad idea. After all, who would be a better place to gain reputation from other than Qingzhou's number one sect, one of the four largest sects in the world, the Sword Sect? Help me greet Aunt Ning. Yu Yu is my junior brother. Why would a senior brother greet a junior? It really is him. Although he didn't mention senior brother Yu Yu, he didn't deny that he knew him. Yes. Oh yeah. Little Chen, don't disappoint me. Brother, what are you looking at? A flying advertising poster. Sect Leader Lu didn't admit he knew Senior Brother Yu Yu, while Senior Brother Yu Yu didn't mention Sect Leader Lu's name. It seems like they think alike. The two of them must want to hide their friendship and rivalry. Until the day they announce it and shake the entire world. Once I'm back, I'll spread the legend of the mysterious Senior Brother widely but I will definitely not include a single bit of information about sect leader Lu. This is a secret only between me and senior brother Yu Yu. Oh yeah. Reputation value plus one, reputation value plus one, reputation value plus one. Seven days after Chen Shao left, it's been seven days, has he not returned to the sword sect yet? Where did this tool man go to fool around? Half a month after Chen Shao left, reputation value plus one, reputation value plus zero. It's been so long since he finished his sect mission, why isn't he back to report back yet? They should improve on how they train their disciples. A month after Chen Shao left, reputation value plus zero, reputation value plus zero, little Chen, little Chen, the next time we meet, I'll definitely smack your head till it crooked. Sword Sect Blah 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 that sect leader Lu blah blah blah. Senior brother Chowga actually broke through that fast? Then, isn't it a matter of time for him to surpass me? Blah blah blah, the me at that time, won't I be like a child, unable to catch up to even his shadows? Blah blah, no. This won't do. This can't be. Senior brother Yu Yu, what's wrong? Junior brother Chen, we'll separate here. I have a new realization, so I will need to do close cultivation for some time. The peerless sword entity sure makes one jealous. He can have a realization any time he wants. He, but I'm on my way to a huge class now. 
I'll definitely spread the legend of the mysterious senior brother and the threat that he posts. And I'll definitely, for sure, not yet anyone know sect leader Lou's name. Mystery. There must be a sense of mystery. I, Chen Xiao, won't utter the name of sect leader Lu even till death. Time flies, the spring season has come. Yet, in Lu Chao's heart, Chen Xiao has thoroughly died. Chen Xiao has died. I have to think of a different way to expand the sect. 212 days till Tian Xian World's beta test. How else will a small sect like this attract new new players? How troublesome. What new players prioritize the most is strength. A sect with these few disciples, even if it's me in the past, I wouldn't spare a glance. Ha, sect leader is sneaking glances at me. Well, except for old perverts. But I want to expand my sect. If I gathered a bunch of old perverts, what's the use? I definitely have to get my hands on skilled and professional players. Only then will our sect have a future. Speaking of skilled players, I suddenly recalled the past and that master of mine. I wonder if we'll meet in this life too. Do you really like your master? I raised my favorability with my master to the max in my past life, to the point where that cold war god confessed to me. I should stop thinking about her. The more I do, I'll not be able to hold myself back from searching for her. Let me check on the disciples out of the mountain first. Why aren't any of them returning yet? It's so empty here because of that. It's the Wan Min Bell. What happened? Finally, I finally waited long enough for it. After this many chapters, I finally. I can show off again. The Wan Min Bell was placed in front of the mountain gates from the day M.O. Sek was founded. There are 301 similar bells in the Qingzhou district. Each is placed in front of a sect, including the sword sect and the other 300 sects. Every bell is not cheaply made. It was personally forged by sword sect's ninth lord sword sovereign. Throughout the thousands of years, it can ring on its own without the use of spiritual energy. Everyone could only guess there was something inside it a perpetual machine. Its function is simple. If there's something that happened in the mortal world, by just lighting a special incense, the bell will ring on its own. It's also named Emergency Hotline, Xianxia Version. However, even though there are this many of them placed out there, not every single one is useful. The one at MO Sect usually didn't end up well when wrong. Is it already declining? Sect Leader, will you need Luo Bing to make a trip down the mountain to check? Young Lord, please use Luo Bing as you want. No need. I will personally go. This is the perfect chance for me to show off. How can I give it to you? Disciple is willing to go with you. We shouldn't delay it any longer. In case things worsen. You may come with me. Yes. Completely no presence. Sinful disciple. Sinful disciple. Hmm. The Fog River. Young Lord, it's the Fog River again? As long as I'm away from my master, I can call him Young Lord. Master seems to hold a lot of hostility towards any women who come near Young Lord. But the Young Lord is such a talented, divine person. How could other women not take the initiative to approach? Since we can't make all of them leave, might as well join in? But I came from a lowly background, so I won't aim to become the sect leader's wife or to become master's sister-in-law. If I can become one of them, it's good enough. The last time the Wan Min bell rang, the place where the incense was lit was here, the Fog River. I wonder what really happened this time. Fog River. A cultivator came. On a cultivator from M.O. Sect came. Old So greets Sect Leader Lu. To think it's M.O. Sect Sect Leader himself. Village Head, what's wrong? Sect Leader Lu, it's a water ghost. A water ghost has come again. Again? This is bad. Seems like the guys didn't do anything last time. Young Lord is going to be mad. You have triggered a mission. There really is a water ghost. Fog River's water ghost. Remove the water ghost hiding at the bottom of the Fog River's riverbed. 
Mission Reward, 10,000 Experience Points. The reason why Young Lord is this angry is because half a year ago, we've already eliminated the Water Ghost once. Half a year ago. When the bell rang that time, Master was in closed cultivation, and the sect leader went down to handle some affairs. Only Brother Hei Ting and I were left on the mountain. We were still too weak at that time, so if we've gone through rashly, we might just sink in the river. Therefore, we acted on our own decisions, bringing our sect's spiritual stones, and went to seek help from a middle-class sect in the same district. At that time, that middle-class sect accepted our spiritual stones, promising they would eliminate the water ghost. Young Lord even praised us when he came back. You two did well. This place is under M.O. sect, so of course we have to take good care of it. It's just spiritual stones, it's no big deal. But clearly, those guys took our spiritual stones, yet they didn't take this matter seriously. Great, just fucking great. How dare they scam people, even scamming me. How brave of them. Tian Xian World's ghost monsters are not born from someone's resentment. But it's born from the accumulation of many resentment. Water ghosts can only be born from the resentment accumulated from all the people who drowned over many years. As expected of M.O. Sex Sect Leader, H. He can actually walk on water. The disciple from that middle class sect who came last time looked down on us and wasn't even as great as Sect Leader Lu. And in the same place, it can't hold two water ghosts. Therefore, this one can only be the same one that wasn't eliminated before. Those bastards only came for show. Village head, were there any injured? Xiao Mazi's dad died. When he went out to fish, he even said he would buy candies back for his son. Sai. When we found him, he had already turned into a dry corpse. Pitiful family of his, now fatherless and widowed. Luo Bing, stay here and guard them. I'll return quickly. Understood. System, lock on target. You have found the target water ghost. Level 20 water ghost, born out of resentment, for half a year. Its ghostly aura is very strong. It really is the one from last time. I wonder what's going on down there. Is sect leader Lu okay? It's just a water ghost. Sect leader Lu can definitely kill it. Water ghost. It's the one that killed little Matsi's dad. Then where is sect leader Lu? Scram. Wah. Close your eyes quickly. Where's sect leader Lu? They're gone. The water ghost has been eradicated. We didn't even get to thank him. Luo Bing, let me ask you. Which sect was it that you sought help from last time? Shuei Yu sect. Shuei Yu sect, the sect that specializes in water sword skills. You two really chose the most fitting one. You killed the water ghost. You have received 10,000 experience points. Young Lord, are we heading towards Shuei Yu sect now? That goes without saying. But for now, there's something to be done. It's a waste of time sowing this. I told you many times to be careful when fishing, don't just think you're good at swimming. If I had known that would happen, I should have worked on it and finished sewing it before, then at least when you passed on that day, you won't have to wear such ragged clothes. Where did dad go? Where's my Tom Hulu? Why is he not coming home yet? Mom's crying because of him too. Xiao Ma, go open the door. Okay. Hmm? Is, is dad back? To the vast Qingzhou district, it was only the death of a small fisherman. But to a family, it was the death of a husband and a father as well as the pillar of the family. Young lord, that child doesn't seem to have any potential for cultivation. But I think that child has a face of good fortune. Who knows what he will be like in the future? We can't tell just yet. A great opportunity like Xiao Qiu, what will his life be like? Since the young lord has said this way, I'm sure this child won't be a nobody in the future. Although the young lord always does things in secret, he's actually a really gentle soul. 
All of MO6 people thought this way. This is only an opinion strictly among MO6 people. Shuei Yusek Cham Wan Mountain. Shuei Yusek, among the hundreds of middle class sects, ranked 98. Their sect leader is reaching his limit, closing himself off from the world desperately trying to break through. While the elders hated each other's guts, the sect was a mess inside. But despite that, it was still true that they could easily beat M.O. Sect, who was at the bottom of the hundreds of low-class sections, what a beautiful divine couple. They must not be ordinary people. Dare I ask which sect did the two of you come from, and for what reason have you come to the Shuei Yu sect? You have triggered a mission, rules. Shuei Yu sect's disciple, Ming Fong, did not take things seriously when accepting the request from M.O. Sect after taking the spiritual stones. He did not kill the water ghost as he promised, and therefore did not fulfill his responsibility towards the bell. As the sect leader of M.O. Sect and the protector of Fog River, you must let him understand M.O. Sect's greatness as well as the rules of the cultivation world. Go and make a mess, sect leader. Let me check all these NPCS names if Meng Fong is here. Passerby A, Passerby B, Passerby C, Passerby D. Seems like he's not here. Let's look for him. Please hold on. Are you trying to trespass Shuei Yu sect? We're talking to you. We won't be nice anymore if you refuse to answer. So you guys have a Wan Min bill too. Then I'll let you guys come and see me yourself. Go. How dare you? Do you know what that bell is? How presumptuous. Damn it, who exactly is he? T that gaze of his, why does it seem like he's looking down at ants? I don't dare to step forward. I'll ask you one more time. Who are you? Which sect do you come from? And what did you come to Shuei Yu sect for? The Wan Min bell is ringing, yet no one stepped forward to answer it. The bell, he's talking about the Wan Min bell, it can't be. He's wearing such luxurious clothes and his appearance is quite good looking too, perhaps. Is he the legendary, sword sex and force disciple? If that's the case, we're going to be in big trouble today. Sword sex and force disciples are such a pain in the ass. They're hard to deal with. We have to report to the superiors right away. The question is, among the four of us, who's going to report it? I'm not going to do such thing. Go by yourself if you want to. The first elder and second elder are at cold war now because for the sect leader position, I'm not going to ask for my own death by going. Anyway, I'm definitely not going either. Why are those men looking at each other like that? How disgusting. Are you guys done yet? If no one leaves to handle this right now, don't blame me for being merciless. I'll go report it. I'll go too. I want to follow as well. How can you leave without me? Young Lord, did you make a trip here to teach that irresponsible disciple a lesson? No, for that little family, I want to. Seek justice for them. This little friend, why did you ring the bell? This little friend, why did you ring the bell? Shuei Yu sect first elder, humph. Shuei Yu sect second elder, Shuei Yu sect sect leader went into seclusion. Seeing things go downhill, these two elders fought like water and fire for the position. You two sure have a great chemistry. Who does? Why are the men at Shuei Yu sect all like this? The ones from before, too. Young lady, this old man advises you to be careful of what you say. Even if I swing that way, I wouldn't fancy this shorty. I won't fancy you either. They look a lot like a couple bickering, do they really? Shut up. I'm not here to watch you two make a fool out of yourselves. I'm M.O. Sex Sect Leader, Lu Chowga. So, he's not an enforced disciple, scared me to death. I really thought we were in deep trouble this time. M.O. Sect? Which M.O. Sect? The M.O. Sect from the lower hundred sects? Humph, what matters would you guys have? I'm looking for a person from Shuei Yu Sect today. 
His cultivation base is only at first rank 8th heavenly layer, yet he dares to do whatever he wants at Shue Yu sect? Charging right in our sect to pick on someone, this brat is too outrageous. And who might that be? Shue Yu sect's disciple, Ming Fong. It's my third direct disciple. This brat came straight for me. He, so it's his disciple. This is going to be a good show to watch. The hell? Is the sect leader of M.O. sect out of his mind? Why did he name me specifically and ask to meet me? Perhaps, is it because of my handsomeness that had spread out of Shue Yu sect, reaching far and wide out there? That can't be. With a face like mine, I've already long since received the admiration of thousands of people in this land. As the saying goes, brazen and shameless he is. Wait, M.O. sect, I think I remember now. We're sincerely pleading for Senior Brother to help us, help the Mist River's villagers by killing the Water Ghost. What kind of logic is it to not kneel down when asking a favor from your Senior Brother? I only kneel in front of the young Lord and Master, how could I kneel in front of him? But, Mist River's Water Ghost is going on a rampage. If we held on to our pride now, those villagers would suffer instead. M.O. Sect disciples, Hei Ting and Luo Bing, offer up spiritual stones as a gift, sincerely pleading for Senior Brother to help us out. Now this is more like it. Go back now. It's just a water ghost. I can easily destroy it with a flick of my fingers. He he he, young ladies, I'm in a good mood today. As long as you serve me well, I'll give you good money. I was happy at that time, exchanging that spiritual stones with money and spending it all on alcohol and women. I completely forgot about the matter of the water ghost. He must be here for that matter. Humph. What's there to a trash-like sect? Such a small matter. Did the sect leader have to personally handle it? It's just a water ghost anyways. It can only roam in Mist River and not come out of the water. What kind of trouble can it cause? At most it's just the lives of one or two people. Before cultivating here, I came from a rich family. The slaves at home could be beaten by me whenever I wanted. Furthermore, I'm now cultivating myself as an immortal. How can it be the same between an ordinary person and an immortal? However, since you've come all the way here, I can't let the second elder take advantage of this. Otherwise, how will my master become the sect leader? Since things have come to this point, the best way of handling it is to honestly admit my mistake so that he has no reasons to blame me anymore. He he. I am Meng Fong, who accepted the request of eliminating the water ghost previously. But my skills are a little too low, causing the water ghost to escape. Sect Leader Lu, please punish me for it. Furthermore, I am willing to compensate twofold of the spiritual stones to M.O. Sect. Not bad, not bad. This child has a good temperament and responsible. And he doesn't let others force things on him either. Twofold of spiritual stones are not a small amount either. A small sect looking for trouble with us, what else would they want if not for resources? We'll give it to you then. Mist River's village lost a fisherman. This guy, he's trying to ask for more money. I am willing to compensate threefold. How much is a mortal's life worth in terms of spiritual stones? Threefold is already my limit. Compensate, how laughable. Sword sex sect rule number 16, say it out loud. W what? Say it. Sword sex sect rule number 16, accepting the request through the one men bell, if taken lightly, indirectly causing the loss of lives. T the punishment of getting whipped will be granted. This brat, he wants even more. This is obvious now. He's here to blackmail me. I thought he would be placated with the spiritual stones, but now I can finally watch a good show. Sword sex punishment of whipping has a total of six whips. Three thunder whips on the body, three whips on the Tao heart. The thunder whips are a fine. It's very painful and it is merciless, but in the wonderful world of cultivation, you can still be saved. However, the whip to the heart is different. It's whipped directly to your Tao heart. If yours is not stable, it could cause it to burst open, forever unable to grow stronger and even descend your rank. 
If such a situation occurs, unless you really are gifted by the heavens, you will not recover even if you are a 7th or 8th rank great cultivator. M. Master, save me. You scum. I can't possibly fight him head on, so I can only give him the resource first. I'll get it back later on somehow. After giving you the resources, you should be able to let go of my disciple now. You scum. I can't possibly fight him head on, so I can only give him the resource first. I'll get it back later on somehow. After giving you the resources, you should be able to let go of my disciple now. Sect Leader Lu, let's step aside for a private talk. I'm giving you three options. First, the six whips. Got ignored plus one. Second, receive a sword slash from me. T then, what's the third? There's no third option, I was playing with you. Or how about, the third will be combining the other two options as one. Got ignored plus two. Lu Chao Ge. Is the first elder trying to step aside and settle it in a private talk through the use of bribery? This violates the sword sex rules, doesn't it? If our important guest finds out, how will he view you? You. Master, master. Hurry up and say something for me. Hey, does he still dare to speak up? If he openly broke the sword sex rules, then Shuei Yu sect would be mine. This is it, even the master abandoned me. If you still won't choose, I'll personally help you pick the third option. I, I'll receive a sword slash from you. This guy is just first ranked 8th heavenly layer and is around my cultivation level. Taking on one hit from him would be that much. Anyhow, it's better than receiving that 6 whips. Tell me once you're ready. Relax, I won't unsheathe my real sword. What? He won't unsheathe his sword. If he can still manage to badly injure me, then I won't train with my sword anymore in the future. That brat seems to still be interested in getting resources from me, only pretending to be all serious. Not unsheathing his sword? Why did that brat suddenly turn soft like that? Please, Sect Leader Lu. Okay. It's the power of heaven and earth. Sword intent. Ah. Ah. Ming Fong. It seems like he couldn't handle taking a hit from me. I thought Lu Chaoga had a soft-hearted side to him, but to think he went all out till the end. Master. Senior brother Meng Feng's sword heart shattered. Lu Chaoga. He cultivates, but he doesn't cultivate his heart. This worked out just right. Better stop training with his sword. You, you. It can't be, it can't be. You won't be breaking the sword sex rules just to protect your disciple, right? Ho ho, your disciple had such a miserable fate as his master yet you are afraid of going against the rules, that's even more pitiable. Hurry up and break the sword sex rules, then Shuei Yu sect will be mine. Go and beat him up, look at how arrogant that brat is, how can you hold it in? You, you, he, it's all done. Fine. Sect Leader Lu, you're so young yet you have such great skills. You can hold it and even though he stepped all over you? Are you a coward? You humble me, Shuei Yu Sect's first elder. This is true sword cultivation. This is truly a cool and unrestrained cultivator. Truly, the young lord that I admire. Self added a level 1000 high quality beautifying filter. But... Ming Fong ultimately was the one senior brother and I requested help from. Did young lord intend to stand up for us as well? I've really underestimated you, coward. What a god sent opportunity, I won't let it slip away. Let me fan the flames further. I'll make sure the flames of anger burn even brighter. Getting so badly injured, I'm afraid he has completely become a disabled person. The first elder's hard work over the past 10 years are destroyed in a blink of an eye. It's working. Look, there's so much blood in his mouth. His teeth are broken as well. It seems he can only eat porridge from now on. What a pitiful child, being ruined to this state, 
yet no one standing up for you. He he. I would like to ask the two elders here, if according to the sword sex rules, did Ming Fong have the right to resist? Trying to fan the flames? I hate being used like a tool. Since it has come to this, I'll drag you two down as well. If we're talking about resisting, according to the rules, Lu Chaoga had the right to directly take his life. Then, I'll ask the two elders again, if he could handle one hit from me, would he have gone back safe and sound? What is that brat trying to do? Rather than taking on the six whips, it's indeed the right choice to take on his sword slash. Therefore, it's not that my punishment was too harsh, but that you guys at the Shui Yu sect are too weak. Far too weak. So exaggeratedly weak. Being a waste is your original sin. Far too weak, atrociously weak, too weak. This brat, he's insulting our entire Shui Yu sect. As the sect leader of an entire sect yourself, how could sect leader Lu use your full strength on a mere disciple of our sect? Isn't that too much? So Shui Yu sect's first elder still knows that I'm the leader of a sect and the one who holds the position of a sect leader. According to the rule, my position can't compare to Shui Yu sect's sect leader, but I'm at least half a rank higher than you two elders. Therefore, let me ask you two, why are you not bowing when you stand before me? This, you. Elders, please keep in mind, you two are still not the sect leader. You, you, I. You. Interesting, how interesting. Truly, you're very interesting. Why is she here? We're doomed this time. She, why is she here? Sword Sect the daughter of the Sword Sovereign, Li Nan Wei. Li Nan Wei, daughter of the Sword Sovereign. Compared to Yu Yu's position as the one who serves the Sword Sovereign, her rank is even higher. As the Sword Sect leader's daughter, her position is no less than the Sword Sect. Sheath. Besides her two positions, what's most crucial is. She and Yu Yu are a couple. Yes, it was decided by the official game. You, you must still be having a crush on her at this point, right? So, young lord, likes, likes this type of woman. When I was younger, a few older sisters may have an ordinary appearance, but because men liked those, their earnings were great. Many men entered the brothel, and the beds would shake till late midnight. It seems the young lord really likes this type too. It seems when we return to the sect, I'll have to try out the methods taught by Madam. These sets of tricks work really wonderfully. Remember to massage them more. Okay. Once every night. But Madam also said, the effects are better if someone massages them for me. Sigh. Since she's the daughter of the Sword Sovereign, how high is her level now? Results unknown. It's a strong creature. Please be cautious. The ones that the system can't check are at least 20 levels higher than me, which means she's at least level 40 or above. Direct Disciple of the Sword Sect, Li Nan Wei greets Sect Leader Lu. I've heard about you from Yu Yu. Little Yu Yu, don't say I never helped you out. Is that Brad insane? He dared to accept the greeting from the daughter of the Sword Sovereign? A mere sect from the bottom hundred sects, how dare he? Interesting. This person is way too interesting. Other people always treat me with utmost respect and courtesy, but he receives my greeting plainly like that. Junior brother Yu Yu once mentioned a mysterious senior brother out of the mountains. Could it be it is him? How about testing him a little? Oh? Sect leader Lu knows junior brother Yu Yu too? I wonder what he said about me. Can you share a little? It's all praises. Little Yu Yu, this is all I can help you with. Ha ha ha, shoot, we offended both of them at the same time. I still have matters to tend to within my sect, so I shall take my leave first. Go ahead, sect leader Lu. I am willing to compensate threefold. The threefold of spiritual stones. The debt of the disciple should be shouldered by his master. Take it. Not a single one left out. Keep it well. Let's go. 
Yes, sect leader. He sure is an amazing person. I have to figure out if he really is the mysterious senior brother or not. Our sect produced a sinful disciple and made a fool out of ourselves in front of you. Would you? He better don't train with a sword anymore. This, this sentence, she's representing what the sword sect is saying. You. There's a lot to tend to lately, so I shall take my leave as well. Humph. This is the great disciple you've taught. I sigh. Young lord, the woman from the sword sect is chasing after us. That's way too illegal. Did she blow air into them? Why is she chasing after us? Sect leader Lu, Nan Wei has something to ask. What is it? Spiritual wind skill activated. Sect leader Lu and junior brother Yu Yu, did you two met in your childhood? You can say so. Then, the mysterious senior brother that Yu Yu mentioned must be you. Mysterious senior brother? What the hell is that? What did you do behind my back, that brat? Sect leader Lu doesn't know? You often brought you up in the sword sect, but always refused to mention your name. Even when father asked about it, he still didn't answer. No wonder. No wonder my reputation points didn't increase. The problem lies here. I really want to smack his head. What is filled in that brain of his? That's the strongest person in Qingzhou, the sword sovereign's reputation points. Then, what did your father say upon hearing about this? That. He said he was really jealous. Jealous? The sword sovereign, why did he say jealous? I understand now. Did you understand why father said such words? Lady Nan Wei, do you know what's the loneliest thing in this world? What is it? Spiritual wind skill activated that is seeking to be defeated your whole life, yet still remain unrivaled under the heavens. That is the loneliest thing. That's how it is, I see. That's why the Sword Sovereign would say he's jealous. As the one who serves the Sword Sovereign, Yu Yu holds tremendous talent, exceeding even him, it can be said to be a once-in-a-thousand-year genius. Yet, he has someone like the young master as his rival. That's what the Sword Sovereign was jealous of. Luo Bing congratulates Sect Leader for having such a fortunate encounter. That little lady is quite talented too. She understood the meaning so quickly. M.O. Sect truly cannot be underestimated. Congratulations, my ass. The next time I meet you, you, I'll definitely beat him up. That's reputation points I could have gotten from the Sword Sovereign. Lady Nan Wei, is there anything else you want to ask? If not, we'll be going ahead first. Damn it, I'll settle this debt with him next time. I have to go back to receive the mission reward first. If not, we will be going ahead first? It's my first time hearing something like that. Because anywhere in Qingzhou, as long as she appeared, every sect would scramble to bow down under her feet. It was impossible to say things like we're leaving first. Furthermore, Li Nan Wei personally mentioned her own father this time too. Sect Leader Lu, may Nan Wei stay over at MO Sect for a few days? This person is truly different from the others. He doesn't kiss up to me at all and he's so good looking too. This brat has no value to me and there's no mission related to her either. I can't even conquer her. Yet she wants to return with me, eating and living for free? Dream on. Let me quickly think of an excuse. Huh? Eh? That thing. Sure. You're the daughter of the Sword Sovereign, and you use senior sister to allow me to offer my hospitality to you. Young Lord never liked any outsiders. Why did he? Ha ha ha. Is that so? Ha ha. As expected, the young lord prefers bigger ones. Massaging plan. I'll start it tonight. Danqing Mountain. That's the guest room over there. Make yourself at home, Lady Nan Wei. All right, thank you, Sick Leader Lu. Find some time to settle that pair of mother and son well. Don't let them live a difficult life. 
Yes, I understand. Next, it's to receive my rewards. I wonder what good things I'll be getting this time. He he he. Please accept your mission rewards. System, I want to receive my mission rewards. Releasing the mission rewards. It has started again. Previously when I saw these special effects, I commented that it was too crass. It sure is a weird feeling seeing it again now. Experience points plus 20,000 HM. This is normal. Next. Assessing the mission. Begin. Not again. Do your special effects not cost any money? We will now begin the assessing of your mission progress. Huh? Shitty systems like this always like to act dramatic. Can't you just give me the score directly? Two. This is fine. Congratulations, you have received 82 points for the mission assessment, receiving 82 reputation points. 82? So how will I get the remaining 18 points? Reputation points, it seems if I want to get higher points, I will have to beat up the elders aside from beating up the younger one. I shouldn't have let that two shitty elders go. Reputation points, 1047 slash 1000 HM, the reputation points are enough to exceed the 8th ranked sex. If so, requirements to upgrade to 8th ranked sect, reputation points, 1047 slash 1000, 3 sect members of 2nd ranked and above, 1 third, disciples over 100, including external disciples 8 out of 100. There's still two requirements to fulfill. The third one is a hassle but the second one should be easier. Furthermore, I have gained enough experience points for myself lately. Then, let's level up two levels for now and become second rank directly. Level up 19, level up 20, first rank great completion. Brother has broken through again. And it's two levels at the same time. First rank completion? Leveling up by two levels isn't difficult. Both Junior Brother Yu Yu and I have done it before, but at Chuei Yu Sect, he really was first rank only. If so, he managed to manifest sword intent at such a rank. How can that be? Even if it's father, he personally told me that don't bother trying for sword intent if you're not at least third rank. Even the once in a thousand year genius Yu Yu could only form his sword intent after reaching third rank. Should I rush there and capture him for a deeper investigation? No, I have to calm down. I'm the daughter of the Sword Sovereign. How can I do something like this? But, but. Ha, ha, ha. That really is a sword intent formed by a first rank. I want it. I really want it. Everyone, please don't misunderstand. Lee Nan Wei is only obsessed with swordsmanship. Hold it in, hold it in. He must still be absorbing and digesting. I'll wait till tomorrow morning to capture him myself. I mean, ask him. She truly is, a little too obsessed, and it's not the first time. I heard you have a once in a thousand years peerless sword body. I really want to thoroughly investigate you, what? Senior brother, save me. Save me. That night, no one knows what happened. But what's worth mentioning is, Yu Yu continuously mumbled that senior brother despite being unconscious. One, two, three, four. Two, two, three, four. One more time, as for Lu Chao Ge now, he had no idea what to digest or absorb, only grinning sinisterly. Leveling up mission. He he. It's another mission to help me level up. Yellow. Blue, purple, orange. Last time the orange level gave me a spiritual awakening voucher. This time I'll surely also. Choose it again. Orange. You have successfully accepted the leveling up mission, difficulty level, orange. What a coincidence. It truly is like pushing yourself into hell even when there isn't a door. Leveling up mission, kill the demonic cultivator from the mysterious organization. It looks like the coming year won't be peaceful. Countdown 48 hours. Hunting time begins now. You should appreciate the last few hours from now, since that will be the last moments of your life. The next morning. 
Cultivating every day is Lu Chao Ji's habit. Small matters won't make him change his habit. In other words, he thinks hunting and killing demonic cultivators is considered a small matter. It's morning. Sect Leader Lu, this cultivating skill of yours is quite interesting. He he. Lady Nan Wei, don't you know it's very rude to interrupt when people are cultivating in silence? Can't let women get off so easily or she'll climb up to my head. Nan Wei knows her faults. This girl may be obsessed with swords, but I'm still a man with a charm of ten. I should avoid her. Big Brother and his younger disciples shouldn't interact so much or rumors would grow. Lady Nan Wei, I have something to deal with outside the mountains. You can move about freely in M.O. Sect, no need to be reserved. Ah, uh, wait up, Sect Leader Lu. Nan Wei has something to ask. Go on. Sect Leader Lu, my father once said, no one can form their sword intent before reaching third rank. But you did it, why is that so? It means the Sword Sovereign is wrong. Sword Sovereign, wrong. Sword Sovereign is the leader of swordsmanship and the brightest ray of light in all of Qingzhou's swordsmanship. If anyone heard such words from Lu Chao Ge, they would only say he's out of his mind. Father, he's. I may be the leader of swordsmanship in this generation, but it doesn't mean I am what defines it. If you met him too, I'm sure you'll really like him, right? What will be the reward after completing this orange-leveled mission? It makes my blood boil with excitement just thinking about it. Even though he hasn't even found the target of this mission yet. My cute monster, clean your neck and get ready to die. Although Lu Chao Ge called him a cute monster, everyone please don't really think that way. Among the same level demon cultivators, the ones who have other beasts following them and have a strong bloodline, able to fight while growing stronger by consuming others, they are definitely existences that you can't fight on your own. Jean Yo Village Don't run so fast, you'll trip over. He he. There's a small river next to the Jin Yo village, and the water was really clear. He he not bad. I found another one. A human village. Slurp. You guys are surely very hungry, right? Then go, eat up. Go and eat up those fresh blood and flesh. That kid smells great and made me started drooling already. W what is that? It's a monster. A monster. Run. Hurry up and run. Eh. Ah. Don't hurt my child. This is, huh? Back off. Eh, are you a cultivator? Thank you. Thank you. Level 21 Giant Snake, Level 20 Giant Spider. HM, a level 21 and a level 20, not bad. Don't be so rash. Let me see who's so brave here. To get in the way of our meals. So handsome. Cough, cough, you seem really tasty. So, do you want to eat me? Or, in what way do you want to eat me? I want to rip you to shreds. And eat you with a dipping sauce. That's not the way of eating I look forward to. I thought you'd choose a tamer, nicer way to eat. You want to fight me, you're courting death. The water ability. Uh? The power of heaven and earth? Bye bye. Big Brother, be careful. Rest assured, Big Brother is really strong. That's an uncle. He's so good looking, so he must be a Big Brother. Level 20, my level is too low. Using a few random skills drained one-fifth of my mana bar. I have to end this quickly. A mere beginner's rank dares to challenge me. It seems I have to return your courage properly. 
Rip him to shreds. Attacking at the same time? That's exactly what I wanted. Hurry up. It's boring if you're so slow. Missed. Hurry. He's trying to hide. Hide? How will I fight you head on if I hide? A real man can't always back down. Water pressure. Water pressure, as its name implies, is to increase the pressure of the water vapor and press it down on the enemies. Splash ink. At last, it's only you left. How do you want to eat me now? I want to rip you to shreds. Force you to stay conscious. And let you watch as I eat your flesh bit by bit. Oh ho, that's quite cruel. That made me recall foreigner friends who eats bullfrogs like that too. A chance. Die. Didn't you know my power of heaven and earth is water already? Yet you still used a poisonous mist made up of water? Is your brain okay? Oh shoot. Return. Ah. Huff huff, wow, you're still not dead yet? I'm begging you, spare, spare me, I, I'll do anything, my body is great. You, you can do anything. To be honest, that few instances of pleasure, I used to be addicted to it too. Plus, your body is a tempting, sinful one. But now, women will only influence the speed in which I draw my sword. Furthermore, the dead souls of those who you ate, they want you to die sooner. Big Brother One Big Brother is amazing. Ah. Be Big Brother. To think I still got injured, sobs, sobs. Sobs, Big Brother got hurt because he saved me. It's all my fault, sobs. Look. Wow. So pretty. Big brother. Thank you for saving us, Sir Cultivator. Thank you for saving us, Sir Cultivator. Sir Cultivator, we're unable to return this great favor. Can you leave behind your name? This venerable is M O Sex Lu Chao G E. The design isn't too bad, but the material can't be used. These beast clothes are of a low quality, and it's only a low yellow grade item. Forget it, I'll sell it when there's a chance. After all, this dress is too revealing. With a bigger movement or action, it would be easy to cause unintentional exposure. Immoral, truly immoral. They're still thanking me. This is Ching Zhou, huh? Tianqian world's cultivators cannot become immortals. We're only a little stronger than the ordinary people. Yet, the common people of Qingzhou unconditionally believed that the sword cultivators would protect them. After all, what is the point of wielding a sword if it's not to protect the weak? This is the storage bracelet of that female demon cultivator. Let me see what's in it. HM? Spiritual stones? Only these few? Why is she even poorer than me? Huh, there's a bigger one. Rest in peace. I've exacted revenge in your stead. Purple Moon Badge, two of them. She was an official member of the organization. It wasn't a waste to kill her. There's nothing else. She sure was poor. The best item she had was worn on herself. We'll see if the system can give me a better surprise. Submitting mission results. The mission rewards this time will be given through a roulette. Wishing you great fortunes. The rewards for this orange leveled mission is divided into four ranks. A is the best, D is the worst. Please start the roulette. This A, you're giving it such a small space? Is that fair? Very much so. Where did you learn this from? Hmph, since it's like this. Wouldn't it be easy as hell to get the rank rewards with my luck? I'll show what it means to be the luckiest player. 
Activate, here I go. Gulp. It's stopping. A. 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 Fuck. Huh? It's not stopping? That works too? You're not toying with me, right? Don't overthink it, hee Hey, don't try to escape by throwing a reward to me. Huh. Special grape item, copying voucher. It can copy any item you touch in this world, one-time use. This is basically a cheat level treasure. To put it in simpler words, if this world has a cheat item, then using this item, I can copy it for myself. The world's main character's cheat item, isn't it at my home? That item is something owned by all four main characters in the Tianqian world. Yu Yu has one too, there must be a huge secret behind it. Since that item comes from this world's extremely big sect in ancient times Tian Yi Dao. Since this world's main characters has it, then I, the chosen one, must have it too. I'll ask her to let me touch it later. Since, there are five members in the four heavenly kings, this is common knowledge. Then, it's time to level up next. Level up 21, first rank, broken through. Not bad. After going above level 20, my spiritual power has increased by one fold. My ability to control water has also gotten stronger. It goes without saying for other stats too. If I were to encounter anyone around level 20 like that female demonic cultivator, I should be able to handle it easily. Since I'm a man who cultivates with a purple ranked ability scroll. Who knows if the following volumes would be higher level ones. Since purple ranked cultivation skills are already the highest level in Tianqian world. Orange ranked ones only exist in the ancient times, created by the sect leader of Tian Yi Dao, the biggest ranked sect. It's lost with time now. From the ancient times till now, there were many talented beings born in the Tianqian world. All of them stood out in their own ways and shone as bright as the stars in the sky. But if one were to talk about which star shone the brightest, then it had to be Tian Yi Dao's sect leader. Legends has it that if the father was a human and the mother was a demon, it would be hard to give birth to any children after being unified. Even if they did, the child would be either human or demon. Yet, this sect leader just happened to be a half-demon. He was born with a frail body with all sorts of illnesses. No matter what kind of medicines, it could do nothing at all. His body was forever cold. No one thought he could survive. His life was filled with misfortunes. It was his fate. However, all by himself, not only did he survive, he even started a whole new generation of cultivation. In the past, the cultivation sex standards were a lot higher than the ones now. An ordinary person could never enter such a wonderful cultivation world in their entire life. Chi Cultivation Scroll but he created the Qi Cultivation Scroll that could be learned by even ordinary people without talent, who gave a chance to many people. With that, he changed the fate of the entire weak human race. This is the miracle he granted this world. As for Tian Yi Dao, it means, under the heavens, with one person's strength, almost equivalent to what the Tao is. Tian Yi Dao Sect And what's worth a mention is, Tian Yi Dao Sect in the past settled in Qingzhou. Qing Zhou was also named after that person's name, Qing. As he was half human and half demon, the 8th rank's demon was referred to as the saint, and above the 8th rank were referred to as emperor. People referred to him as Emperor Qing. M.O. Sect. H.M. He's back. Ha. Sect Leader Lu. Sect Leader Lu. This crazy woman couldn't have been waiting for me all along, right? Sect Leader Lu, did you break through again? Second rank. He's in second rank already. In just one day. Such speed, no one in the entire sword sect could rival him. Not even me or you you. Lady Nan Wei, what's the matter? Indeed, I have something to ask Sect Leader Lu about. Sect Leader Lu, please enlighten me. This girl is just like her dad. Sword Addicts When the Sword Sovereign was younger, he went around starting fights with others. 
He was sharp, but people described it as, this type of sword would snap easily. But after the sword sovereign reached the peak, others changed the way they described him to, to think I once crossed swords with him in the past. Therefore, facing the sword sovereign's daughter's challenge, Lu Chao Ge. Sure. But I have a request. As long as it's not overboard, please do say it. I'll draw my sword once, and it will end after that. Okay. Once is enough. Once will be enough to stop my itch. The man who formed a sword intent in first rank, my heart is itching too unbearably. Ah. I really want to cut him down. Follow me. M06 Martial Arts Field is ahead. Okay. Ha. Hey. Ha. Xiao Chiu, you're doing it wrong. Look at how the second senior sister teaches you. Your sword should be like this. Wow. Second senior sister is so amazing. Not bad. Sect leader Lu. MO6 atmosphere sure makes one envious. Please. MHM. Brother. Sect leader. Master. Sect leader. Why do they feel even bigger again? Why is the massage not working? Could it be that it has to be massaged by someone else? Sect leader Lu, Nan Wei knows a little about Aura. This disciple's aura has a layer of hazy black aura covering him. It's a small matter. This venerable one never believed in fate. Then, what is fate to sect leader Lu? Why? Why did you give him a chance to show off? Fate is an excuse for the weak, but a humbling word for the strong. My fate is in my own hands, not in the heavens. W, what an amazing speech. Lady Nanway, please. Ah, I really want to cut you down. Join us or get cut into pieces. So brother came to spar with her. Is young lord going to spar with that big-breasted disciple? Sect leader is going to fight again? Sect leader Lu is currently in first heavenly layer of second rank, then I shall seal my cultivation to the same level. Second rank first heavenly layer. Ah, he's a second rank just from leaving the mountains for a while. Big Brother broke through again, amazing. That girl reacted like it's normal. Shouldn't she be overjoyed that I broke through again? Sect Leader Lu, you said you will only draw your sword once. So, this slash from me, I'll go all out too. Snow? This is. So pretty, this isn't snow at all. It's sword intent. This whirling snow is that sword sovereign daughter's sword intent. Sword intent. As expected of you. I'll also use my skill now then. Gung position. It's not that easy to break through my sword intent. This is my strongest skill. Li Nan Wei, daughter of the Sword Sovereign, senior sister of Yu Yu. Breaking into the fourth rank before turning 20, only one step away from being a great practitioner. Unfortunately, I've seen through your weakness. After all, that fight you had with Yu Yu in my past life was known to everyone. It was in that fight too that you became a couple with Yu Yu. Therefore, for this fight, I've already had the cheat from the start. Eh? They're matched up? A tie? Lady Nanway, you dropped something. Eh? He only won by a bit? Or did he intentionally let me off easy but actually won against me by a lot? Regardless of which it is, he still won. It's my loss. Brother won't lose, as expected. Sect leader is so amazing, of course he's the strongest. But Nanway doesn't understand. Whether it's sword intent, skills, experience, I'm not weaker in any way compared to you, so why? You have a weakness, think of it properly. What I grabbed a hold of is that weakness of yours. Sect leader Lu grabbed a hold of my flaw? A flaw? Eh, what is a flaw? 
So shameful. Why are they talking about this so openly? Every woman has two censored and a censored, so make good use of them. Ah. Really, really what? Seeing your sister, what's wrong? It's in nothing. Am I the only dirty-minded one? It's that. The gum position. Could it be he already saw through my weakness from the start? Perhaps this handsome sect leader Lou's mastery in swordsmanship has far exceeded my imagination. I've been enlightened. Enlightened? Was the sect leader teaching that sister swordsmanship? That's the daughter of the sword sovereign, Shao Chiyo. Don't speak as you wish. Big Brother did indeed teach that daughter of the sword sovereign. Sect leader is truly the best in the world. I, Shao Chiyo, will definitely become the second sect leader. No need to be courteous. Copying such an important tool, it seems it'll have to take a bit more time. Copying progress 0.336%. To think it'll take this long. Could it be that this wooden plate has a big secret? Don't we have a human secret decoder here? Phew, it seems you're okay. Huh, Lady Nan Wei cares for this item so much. Could this wooden plate have some amazing side to it? Honestly speaking, this wooden plate is indeed not a normal one. It can't be kept into any storage tools. I got this wooden plate in a location that has traces of Tian Yi Dao. It can be seen as a small thing they left behind in this world. Except for being unable to be kept, it can be used to calm the mind. HM, quite interesting. It's not that treasurable indeed, just that Yu Yu is very interested in Tian Yi Dao so I plan on gifting this to him when I return. No wonder that thing ended up in Yu Yu's hands, why are you smiling like that? This girl is really seeing Yu Yu as a child. But why did things change later? This Yu Yu. To think he's into one sands. Since I've fulfilled my wish, I'll be leaving now. I've learned a lot and want to thank this chance to. Understood. Go now. Remember to greet the Sword Sovereign in my stead. Okay. Farewell, all M.O. Sex Disciples. This time, my name will finally enter the Sword Sovereign's ears, right? How many reputation points will I gain? Damn it. That woman has gone back for so many days already. Why is there no sign of my reputation points increasing at all? When I find the chance, I'll rush into the sword sect. Beat up all the direct disciples of theirs. Copying is completed. Ching Zhou, sword sect at the same time that Lu Chao's wooden plate has successfully copied, Yu Yu was going through a turmoil. Senior sister is training in seclusion in the wooden house behind me. I'm guarding here for her. Logically within the sword sect, there shouldn't be anyone who would get in her way. Junior brother, I know who's that mysterious senior brother that you mentioned now. Could senior sister Nan Wei meet senior brother Lu Chao Ge when she left the mountains this time? I really want to know what happened between them. Did senior brother Lu Chao Ge mention me? Which rank is he in now? Ah, uh, I'm so bothered. Calm down. T, this is. It's Senior Sister Nan Wei's sword intent. Phew, Senior Sister Nan Wei. Congratulations for completing your training, Senior Sister Nan Wei. I finally filled in that flaw of mine. Senior Sister's smile. A woman's satisfied smile has extra charm to men. This won't do. I have to hurry and ask about Senior Brother Lu Chaoga instead. Junior Brother, here, this is for you. This is? I found this where Tian Yi Dao used to live. It's not that useful, but I know you like collecting small things like this, so I brought it back for you. Tian Yi Dao. Oh, and look at the string attached. It was cut off a few days ago, so I had to reattach new ones. It was cut off by your outstanding senior brother Lu Chaoga. It was cut off by senior brother Lu Chaoga. Senior sister, did you spar with him? What rank is Senior Brother Lu Chaoga in now? Did his sword intent improve? How's his swordsmanship? Enough. Stop right there and ask one by one, can't you? Sorry, Senior Sister. 
Let's go there. I'll slowly tell you about it. Sit. It was too fast for words to describe. Oh. As expected of senior brother Lu Chowga. And he has only broken through the first rank for not more than four months, yet he did it again. Oh, right. Senior sister, you went to meet the sword sovereign first when you got back. At that time, did you mention senior brother Chowga? No. Why? Because I have a feeling that he'll bring a bigger surprise to dad. Won't that be more interesting? The leader of swordsmanship and the new rising star, how will they clash when they meet? Surprise, huh? At this time, Lu Chowga was investigating the wooden plate he just acquired. This thing doesn't seem that special. But that's not important. Since with this, I'll be the fifth heavenly king among the original four. Let me inject my divine consciousness and see how it goes. Divine Consciousness HM? The inside, it's actually this spacious? This is within the wooden plate? I came in just like that? There's nothing much, huh? Eh? I'm out again if I retrieve my divine consciousness? Quite interesting. Let me try again. I'm in again. Ah, uh, I'm out again. Hey, I'm in again. I'm out again. After entering and exiting a few more times, Lu Chowga had become sick of it. Are there no other interesting ways of using it? Li Nan Wei said you could meditate with it, but what's the point of that? Wait, that pure white space, could it be that all the main characters can enter there? If everyone can enter, doesn't that mean it's a place for legendary connections? If so, then this pure white space is actually Tianxian World's online group chat for the main characters? Oh ho, interesting. Since Yu has gotten his own wooden plate, why not try it out? Let's go. None, scratching on the wooden plate forms marks like that? Then doesn't that mean I can write words too? At Sword Sect. The wooden plate that senior sister Nan Wei gifted me, why is it reacting strangely? Let me try injecting my divine consciousness. What is this? Where is this? Under the heavens, with one person's strength, almost equivalent to what Tho is. Uh? This is Tian Yi Dao's Emperor Qing. Could it be this is his legacy? That's impossible. How can his legacy be in such a small wooden plate? Under the heavens, with one person's strength, almost equivalent to what cultivation is. That beloved son of the heavens was the strongest person in the history of the Tianqian world. Even his five disciples were all at ninth rank. How could I have such luck to acquire his legacy? Yu Yu, wake up. At this time, Lu Chaoga. I wrote it so well, why isn't anyone replying to me? Damn it, also, my nickname Nun is a little weird, I wonder what theirs are. I'll write another one, I don't believe you still can't see it. None have you all awoken yet? He knows of my existence. All? Could there be others here? Did others get chosen too? There. There really is someone else. None, have you all awoken yet? Yellow, how could there be such code names? Isn't this too much? Yellow, I just have to write on the wooden plate to be able to talk to you despite the distance, right? This brat can't be thinking he's talking to me one to one, right? The other three, come out now. None, the other three, have you awoken? Four? There are four people? This mysterious person knows how many we are. Did he drag us here with his ability? What kind of terrifying ability is this? None, the other three, have you awoken? Heaven, yes. Earth, yes. Dark, yes. Human's instinct is to follow others, huh? So the code names together are heaven and earth, dark and yellow. I even thought you were just color-coded at first. Yellow, may I know how to refer to you? I still haven't asked you, yet you asked me first. But, at this time, a perfect plan had already formed in my mind. Let me show you what's defined as a true master. None you may all refer to me as. 
The guide. The guide. Who is he exactly? How strong is he? I'm in the sword sect, right under the sword sovereign's nose, yet still he's undetected. Could he be even stronger than the sword sovereign? But such a strong character, why would he choose me? Even if he were to choose, he should choose senior brother Lu Chaoga at least. But, this is something related to that legendary sect, Tian Yi Dao, I can't miss out on this chance. I'll keep it a secret from Lord Sword Sovereign for now. When the chance is ripe, I'll report it to him. One should never intend to harm others, but should always guard against the harm others might do to him. Right. That's what senior brother Chaoga had taught me in the past. I can't trust others so easily, so I can't believe in this guy just yet. Guide, if senior brother Chaoga ran into a situation like this, what would he do? Hey, I sure look cool after throwing out those few words. In the 22nd century, people got better and better at exaggerating and showing off online. Lu Chao GE was one of them too since he originally was someone who liked to show off. Guide. Now, I'll just wait for the jumpiest person to jump out and suspect me. He. Heaven, Sir Guide, you said we were all chosen. Then, you must have a good understanding of us. But how should we trust you? Picking a fight, but still using we instead of I. How smart. Unfortunately, what you asked is what I intended for you to ask. I truly do understand all four of you. None. Sword, saber, spear, bow. He does know. He actually knew. We were chosen. Heaven's personality is quite rash. It isn't you, you. Then which one is he? Heaven, I was discourteous, guide. Humph, no more next time. None, no more next time. My first work has been completed. You all may converse freely. If there's anything that happens later, you may write down my name and I'll detect it. This will be all for today. Let's see what they'll talk about among themselves. With a bit of guessing, I'll be able to find out their identities later. But you, you, which is he? Heaven has been excluded. Earth, dark, yellow, which is you, you? The code name Heaven is pretty good. The moon hangs in heaven. It suits my name. With that, the four of them chatted for a bit on the wooden plate, but Lu Chowga still couldn't identify which is Yu Yu. Damn it, to think all of them don't resemble Yu Yu. It seems all of you are two-faced people online. Chat on then. When you have to meet in person, that's when you'll regret it to death. The time flew by like an arrow after the day of the wooden plate chatting. Came the day where Lu Chao Ge had to offer his blood essence again. Don't look so happy, all right, when you drink my blood essence, I'll turn weak. Wait up, I'll give it to you. Ah. Stop. I said only one drop. Hmm, ugh. Hey, I'm already second rank now, according to our promise, you should give the third scroll to me now, right? HM. Air condensing technique, the third volume, purple rank, middle level item. I thought it would be a purple top ranked item, I guess I was too greedy, after all, a purple top ranked item is considered as the most prized treasure in the four biggest six. What do you mean? You're referring to the fourth scroll? Do you mean, the fourth scroll can be a level higher? Oh my god? HM? Cough, cough. The fourth scroll would be a purple top rank technique. You really are amazing. So the phrase, having an elder as family living with you is like having a treasure, means this. Now I have two women on top of me. Doesn't that mean I'm blessed with abundant blessings and fortunes? My dear Lord Ancestor, do you mind if I went into your coffin and increased our friendship to the next level? HM? I almost forgot that you're an idiot. You won't get it even if I joke around. Ah. Why do you understand this sentence? Let go, let go. I have something good for you. Aren't you collecting this? A present for you. Happy, I wonder why you're collecting this for? 
Although I don't know its age, surely it's not that old. Like an expired child, at most. H.M. Sweeping Star Sword Skill, Blue Rank Lower Level. Another Blue Ranked Sword Skill. Smile, it truly is a treasured ghost in my home. I have to hide it well. If those noobs found out, for sure they will try to take advantage of it too. While yelling something like, older sister, do you still need another pet? I'm a good choice. Next, I should give this sword skill to its owner. Don Lee, are you in? I am. Brother, W8 up. Don Lee is taking a bath? Brother, come in. It's already so late. What brings you here? Here. These two sword skill scrolls are for you, M.O. Sex Butler. This is. Wow. Their ranks are pretty high. Just what we need to teach our disciples. Spit it out. Where did you get them? We don't have any money on us right now. You're not allowed to waste it as you wish. How fierce. I didn't spend any money. But to get them, I've made a lot of effort. Don't let my efforts be in vain. Pass on the sword skills to our disciples. As expected, there really should be no such existence of a sister-in-law in this world. Qin Long River by Xiang Valley Deviant Beast, Scaled Dragon Half a year more and it will be the Purple Moon Association's gathering after three years. At this upcoming gathering, if I can get my hands on the Dragon Tongue Jade, then my injuries can be completely healed. Those two bastards. It's been so many years, yet their sword intent still remains here, causing the suffering of this venerable one every single day. M.O. Sect. Once I've fully recovered, I'll definitely hunt down your family and destroy your entire sect. I'm all right. Give it to me. He he he, there, there what a good child you are. Now now, don't cry. I'll release you from this in just a bit. As expected, only the taste of a female baby is the freshest. Once they turn 10 years old, their taste changes and becomes disgusting. If I remember correctly, that couple from the M.O. sect has a son and a daughter. They must already be over 10 years old. However, I'll let them be the exception just this once. After all, the taste of my sworn enemy's daughter must be really sweet, right? That couple from M.O. sect gave it their all just to heavily injure me, causing me to lose the association's favor. The resources that were originally mine were stolen away because of that and I dropped back down to the third rank. M.O. Sect. Once the gathering of the Purple Moon Association ends, I'll let you understand what hell on earth truly means. Ching Long River. By Siam Valley's outskirts, child, my child, return her to me, I beg you, return my child to me, please. She's lost her mind, M.O. Sect, M.O. Dong Fong. Mind clearing spell. Are you from the village nearby? I'll send you back. A big snake snatched my child away. She's my only child, my only one daughter. I can't lose her. I don't want to be like a hen that can't lay eggs anymore. It's been years yet she hasn't given birth to any child. And I thought she would give birth to many children with such a great figure. Hey, that's not for giving birth after all. It's for men's use. Don't tell me your men never ogled at her. I don't believe it. No, I don't want that. Relax your mind. She had too big of a shock. Sigh, it's not just the fact that she lost her child. A cultivator? Isn't that woman from our village? How could there be such a normal-looking, short cultivator? He's different from those I have seen before. Everyone, there are all sorts of cultivators too. If all the coolness in the world is set in stone, then this venerable one is the most one of a kind. There are indeed cool, charismatic cultivators like our sect leader, but there is also the quiet, unnoticeable type like seeing your older brother. Yeah. 
I'm the same type as my senior older brother. However, I would also like to be a cool guy too. That's my wife. Move aside. She's my wife. I found her on my way here. She seemed to have been attacked by a deviant beast, so be it if the child is lost. It's just a daughter anyways, what gives with not having a child? Why are they like this? Sect leader would definitely not like this. If I were to have a group of cultivation partners one day, I would actually prefer to have a daughter. Huh? A group? Isn't one enough? Why do you want a group? How dare you? Guess I'll have little junior sisters by then. The big snake that snatched the baby away is hiding in that valley. If it's not eliminated, then the village will be endangered one day. Shall I go and take a look? What's going on? Is it an earthquake? It's a deviant beast. This is bad. A deviant beast has invaded our village. Run. Hurry up and run. What an overwhelming pressure, but I have yet to even break through the first rank. Can I really win against a monster like that? Yua, my child, my child was taken away by that beast. Things have come to this point. Why are you still caring about something like that? Get up quickly. Hurry up. I'm not leaving. I want my child. I want my child back. Stupid wife, you're asking for death. Fine, if you want to die so badly, then we will die together. Master, I'm sorry. I didn't learn your calmness at times like this. Sect leader, if I were to make a huge ruckus like you usually do, the other sects will notice it, right? Master your sword and you'll dominate anywhere you go. As long as I can buy some time until the other sects arrive, then this beast will be done with. Yeah. I wonder if the me of now has some of what sect leader described as cool. Ching Zhou, M.O. Sect. According to this, if I inject my spiritual energy, there will be a 80 to 90% chance of success. This probability is fake, right? Why did they all fail even when I tried so many times? They set the difficulty of crafting items too high, don't you think? Huh? M.O. Sect Third Disciple, M.O. Dongfang in danger. By Siang Valley, even if I travel at full speed, it will take more than a few hours, and that few hours, normal people could likely have died a few times. M.O. Dongfang, I can't tell if you're a lucky one or an unlucky one. That kid showed really low potential when he entered the sect. It was truly ridiculous, but Core Bone 3, Sword Dao Aptitude 3. His luck was a question mark. Luck unknown. That's why he was getting into weird situations. Eh, I think I won again, boss. Unbelievable luck. Third junior brother was hit by a durian falling from the sky for no reason today. Right now, I hope you're on the lucky end. Han. Ah. Ugh, I think I can't hold on any longer. As expected. Which sect are you from, kid? M.O. Sect. M.O. Dongfang. Ugh. M.O. Sect? I've never heard of it, but you're not bad. That goes without saying. My sect leader once said I was the one who resembled the great sage the most. Great sage? What great sage? That year, Zaoli district. Today, I'm going to talk about journey to the east. As the story goes, there's a swordsman who uses a long sword named R.U.E. Whether in heaven or earth, he's omnipotent. Therefore, everyone calls him the Great Sage, Heaven's Equal. Oh, whether in heaven or earth, he's omnipotent, using a long sword named R.U.E., the Great Sage, Heaven's Equal. I'm the Great Sage. 
I'm the great sage. I am as well. I'm also the great sage. I, I, I want to be the great sage too. But you're so ugly, so you're the monster. Ah, uh, that's right, you're the monster. Ugly monster. Beat him up. Get rid of the monster. Go. I'm not a monster. I won't play with you guys anymore. I won't, whatever. You little ugly freak. Bleh. If you can't take it, then why did you bother coming here to play? Let's go. We'll play over there. I want to be the great sage too. I can do it. Earth deity, come out. Cough, cough. Who's summoning me? It's the earth deity. Lu Chauga, 14 years old. Little deity greets the great sage. Great sage? Me? I'm not the great sage. They all called me ugly, I'm the monster. You little kid, let me ask you. Who told the story? Why you? Then, what if I told you that you're more like the great sage than them? Are really? The great sage won't always lower their head or act without confidence like you. Straighten your back. What I said is the truth, understand? Yes. Also, let me tell you a secret. Eh? I'm a cultivator. Wah. It's Rui. It's a gift for you. Remember to keep it a secret. Okay. Thank you. I'm the great sage too. I'm the one who resembles the great sage heavens equal the most. I have Rui, oh, right. The great sage has to stand up straight with a puffed up chest. Brother, you really think he resembles the great sage heavens equal? Not at all. I was just teasing him. Why are you so nasty? Ha! Although he doesn't resemble him now. But he will likely be in the future. Take him in as your third disciple. But his talent seems really bad. I understand. This is... A dark crow? You're awake? Thank you, senior, for saving my life. My injuries have healed. This senior must have given me a spiritual pill. MHM. May I ask for your name, senior? Chun Chiu Mountains. Jian Xinyan. How cold. Is this the Chun Chiu Mountain that the sect leader has mentioned before? Chun Chiu Mountain, one of the four biggest sects in the world, and on par with Qing Zhou's sword sect. They're the top of the top sex. The Northland Chun Chiu Mountain. But the sect leader once said that their speciality is they will suppress all desires aside from cultivating, but in exchange, they will indulge in one of their desires. According to what the sect leader said, Chun Chiu Mountain's people are mostly expressionless. This senior seems to be the same. It smells really good. It's a high quality spiritual wine. Did this senior choose to focus on? The desire of consuming food and drinks? Cough, once again, thank you, senior, for saving my life. I, M.O. Dongfang, will never forget it. When there's a chance, I will surely repay you. But, if you were to meet a single horned demonic beast, you must report back immediately. It's the archenemy of us, M.O. sect. That dragon beast goes way back with our sect. This matter involves demonic cultivation too. Therefore, I must return to my sect to inform my sect leader right away. Location. Can you even walk back by yourself? T. Thank you, senior. This senior may look cold, but she has a really kind heart. I'm only curious, how exactly is M.O. sect like? to have trained out a disciple like him. Strange, my cultivation rank seems to be shifting. I'm about to break through to the first rank. Lu Chaoga at this moment was a little confused. M.O. Dong Fong has escaped danger. What a wasted trip. Oh well, as long as he's fine. Stabilize yourself more. Okay.
Sect leader. Brother. What are you so lively for? I don't allow it. Sect leader, let me pour you some tea. Damn it. She's completely ignoring me. Sect leader, he, he shout yo, he, he. Huh? Brother, someone's coming. I've never felt this aura before. Huh? There's no one? That's right, master, I don't see. Brother, I can't see through her. She's a great practitioner. It's her. Long time no see, master. At that time, I was exposed to Tian Xian World Game for the first time due to how harsh reality was, hunter dogs. With my great skills and richness, low rank monsters were not a problem to me at all. Furthermore, I didn't treat Tian Xian World as a real world at that time. Deviant Beast, Hunter Dog Level 10. Fuck, this monster is too much. But Tian Xian World's realism quickly made me realize that this world wasn't as simple as I thought. What the hell, the sensation of pain is too real. I can't take it anymore, I'm logging out. System. Log out. Logging out is prohibited. You'll have a reset if you die. What the fuck? There's such thing like this? Damn it. Ugh. It's so painful. I won't really die in the game, right? Damn it all. Once I'm out, I'll definitely sue this company. At that time, I met my real motivation behind playing this game. A great practitioner, you may acknowledge her as your master. Yes slash no? Of course it's a yes. System notice, player's HP is slowly recovering. Failed to be accepted as a disciple. Too low of a favorability level. Trash system. Are you joking with me? Hey. Wait. What is it? That, do you have any ways for me to increase your favorability level toward me? How much money should I top up? Is 500,000 enough? Stop spouting nonsense, you mutt. Interesting, very interesting. This Tian Xian world setting is so much more interesting than those low-quality role-playing games out there. Even topping up real-life money isn't working. Interesting. I apologize. I said the wrong thing. What I meant is, how can I become your disciple? Aside from a slightly better than average appearance, you have no other use. I don't want to accept a disciple like you. Shit. During the start of the game, I poured all my points into my charm, yet there's still a situation like this. However, they do say that women can't take it when a man clings to them. Furthermore, I accidentally found out that she's focusing on the desire for foods and drinks, so I intentionally picked up some cooking skills from my home's top-grade chef. As time passed by, I also became a top-grade chef, being accepted as her sole disciple and chef. There were a few times, it was so close from happening. Sigh, however, what made me regret the most is. I've always wanted to cook that big bird and have a taste of it. I believe the meat would taste really delicious, but sadly I haven't gotten the chance. Why is that guy staring at me like that? Sect leader, master. It's junior brother M.O. Brother, who knows where Dong Farm got to know such a great practitioner. Not only could I not see through her true strength, but Dong Fong's aura is weak, as if he had been injured before. Do you mean, as long as it's not a great practitioner, you'll see right through them? He 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 he. This brat, she hides almost everything about herself. Adding on the artifact which helps hide her aura that she got from Auntie Ning, even I can't tell her true strength anymore. I need to ask her directly about this the next time. Sect leader, master. I ran into a dangerous situation this time. It's all thanks to the senior that I was saved. I shouldn't tell the sect leader about the beast just yet. I'll inform master and the sect leader privately later.
I am MO6 Sick Leader, Lu Chao Ji. Spiritual wind skill activated, this fellow cultivator, what can I call you as? Chun Chiu Mountains, Jiang Xinyan. HM? How is this guy so good looking? As expected, my charm being at level 10 is genuine. What's wrong with that woman? Why is she blushing? Don't think that I didn't see that. Fellow Taoist, since you've saved our MO sec disciple, that counts as fate too. How about staying here for a few days so that I can repay you for this favor? A small sect has such a brave disciple and a female cultivator who may be so young but is nearing my rank. And there's also such a handsome guy. This small MO sect is quite interesting. Your reputation value is increasing rapidly. As expected, even you would look highly upon us MO sect. There's no rush. I know exactly what you are looking for, and I'll satisfy all of that. No need. Fellow Taoist likes drinking alcohol, not tea. Right? HM. Then, feel free to do what you want. It's fine to drink alcohol too. Okay. Oh, this scent, is it possibly the spiritual wine, spring slumber? Lu Chauga, the one who likes to show off, shows up. Indeed it is. The taste of this wine is unique, and the price is expensive too. Many know about it but only a few actually like it. Back at Chun Chiu Mountain, I don't have any friends who like it. If I remember correctly, this wine is brewed with 14 different spiritual herbs, which are namely spiritual ginseng, dragon grass, red plums, blah blah, and all sorts of other herbs. The taste of this alcohol is unique, and the price is expensive too. Many know about it, but only a few actually like it. This guy has such a deep understanding of this wine. Since when did brother become so knowledgeable about alcohol? Sect leader, since when did you become so knowledgeable about alcohol? I didn't expect sect leader Lu to share the same interest as me. Please. I'll accept it gladly. Since when did brother start drinking alcohol? Since when did sect leader start drinking alcohol? That alcohol smells really good. Why are you all looking at me? Gulp, it smells great, I. You can't drink it. All of you, leave first. I just want a sip. My apologies. I really didn't like this thing in my previous life. But if I were to say I don't like it now, will she murder me? Great wine. I'll have to take a sip even if I die today. But, Chao Ji, your master is no longer cool anymore. This wine, it's not as strong as I imagined it to be. Instead, there's other flavors to it. Master. Thank you, cultivators. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Chun Chiu Mountain's techniques are special. Many people tend to choose to emphasize their desire of lust, therefore falling into a passionate love. Master, you're so cool. But for Jiang Xinyan, what they suppressed is that lust, hence why they never understood what love is. Cool, what does that mean? Cool means, you're really amazing, really charismatic, and shining very brightly. As expected of me. To have come up with that instantly. However, I have a senior sister who said that in her eyes, the one that she loves is always shining at all times. HM? What? Are you kidding me? My cool master is falling for some guy out there? This won't do. I have to stop it at all cost. My master will only be my master. So, does that mean the one that she likes is a cool person? Ah, uh, this, how do I explain it? That can't be described as cool. That's not cool at all. Then, what exactly is love? Chowga, do you know? I was waiting for this line. 
This disciple doesn't know what love is, but I do know that, only when you have no one you're in love with, that's when you're the coolest. Really? I thought my plans of stopping my master from falling in love were successful, until that night. Chunchio Mountain. That night, Master rambled a lot of drunken words to me, but with her cultivation level, it should be impossible to get drunk. But, Chauga, your master is no longer cool. How is it? Do you not like how it tastes? Not many like the taste of spring slumber. It's expensive and has a weird taste after all. No, I really like it, and I even have gotten a taste of something nostalgic. The way he looks at me, why does it feel like a long-lost reunion? I clearly only have met him for the first time, so why is he looking at me like that? Cheers, Taoist friend. This jade bottle has been casted with spells. There are gallons of wine in it, drinking this way, he'll get drunk soon. At that time, she said it to me directly. Yet I. Chauga, your master is no longer cool. After all, we were from two different worlds at that time. What's going on with me? How can I have feelings for a game character? What a strange feeling. Am I sick? Or was the world too real that I could no longer differentiate it from reality? The me from that time have yet to really realize my own feelings until that day. These guys, it's a trap from the start. You didn't anticipate it, right? To destroy a small village like this, a low-grade demon cultivator would have been enough, but for you. In order to take the life of Chan Chiu Mountain's Jiang Xingyan, we have gathered of ten great demon cultivators. Whatever, at least those villagers managed to escape. Plus, even if I were to die, you're all coming with me. Still so arrogant even in the face of death. All of you, go. Capture her alive. This cultivator is well known for her cold beauty in the cultivation world. Once she's captured, you can play with her however you like. Oh. Young master, how are my skills? Average. How weird. At times like this in the past, I would lose control from looking at such a great figure. But I don't get why I feel in such a mess today. Important notice. Dozen of demon cultivators have ganged up on a Chanchio Mountains cultivator. A legendary plot progress is commencing. Master is from Chanchio Mountain too. But it shouldn't be such a coincidence, right? As long as I can sleep with this super rich young master just once, I'll have enough money to spend for the rest of my life. At such a time, I need to take the initiative. Go back. I don't have the mood today. What's going on? Am I not attractive enough? Even though all of the men would lust after me when I walk on the streets. How dare those bastards? Thinking of touching Lu Chao Ge's, my master. System, connect, wait, if I were to rush head into it, with just me alone, I won't be able to win against so many demon cultivators. I know. Mere demon cultivators, I'll let you witness what a taste of money is like which is, with a raise of my hand, to summon hundreds and thousands. Therefore, I worked hard on cultivating this summoning skill, and after so many years, it's time to unleash it. Amazing. It took five of my comrades' lives to heavily injure a bitch like you. Go, let her have a taste of it first. Then the rest of you line up and take turns. He he he, a great cultivator from Chanchio Mountain, it's my first time having a go, I heard you guys emphasized on one of your desires. I wonder what did this bitch emphasize on? He he. Taking my own life by sealing my spiritual veins, I thought I would never have to use that, however, it seems the day has come for me to do so soon. But... Chauga, Master can no longer protect you anymore. In the next life, if the heaven permits it, I don't want to be your master anymore. I want to be your. He he, here I come, beauty. Who dares boom to touch my master?
Master, in the next life, you still have to be my master. This brat, I didn't mean that. That's not what I meant. Just you alone, you're thinking of stopping all of us? You're nothing but an extra corpse. You're strong indeed. All of you are high-ranking demon cultivators. I will never be able to defeat you on my... Chowga, run quickly. These aren't what you can handle. Master, I never said I'll be the one to handle them. I have my own ways. Your own ways? Ha ha ha. Your own ways? There are no great cultivators anywhere near this place. What ways do you have? I have a dream since I was young. Which is, with a raise of my hand, to summon hundreds and thousands. Therefore, I worked hard on cultivating this summoning skill, and after so many years, it's time to unleash it. Summoning skill? I've never heard of cultivators who can do that. Chowga, I know you're trying to buy some time, but there really aren't any great cultivators nearby. It's true. I am fated to die here. You're too short-sighted, too short-sighted indeed. Don't just stand there, kill that brat now. My great army, descend. Go. For President Lu. 50,000 for one fight. It's even more than all the money I've spent on this account. Kill all those demon cultivators. I can raise my reputation value even if I kill just one. Let's go. Where did all of these people come from? Their cultivation aren't low either. Run. Quickly run. Chowga. What happened to me, for a game character, to think I spent a few millions in one go, that's half a month's worth of my allowance. It's only a few millions, but it's well worth it. Master, it's all right now. There definitely won't be anything left of those demon cultivators. Okay. Master, are you okay? Chowga. I like. Chowga. Ha. Ha, ha, so close, it was so close. Just a bit more and I wouldn't know how to face her anymore, master and disciple. Lovers? But, she's only made up of a bunch of data, she's not human, Lu Chowga, what's going on with you? Breaking news. Some super rich player spent several millions to forcefully change up the plot. The Chun Chiu Mountains cultivator has been saved. I didn't take that one step in my past life, but in this life, it's different. We're now from the same world. How strange. My heart feels at ease when I talk to him. It has gotten late, so I won't disturb your rest anymore. MHM. Good night, fellow Taoist. Uh. MHM, good night. It was only normal back then. Good night? What an interesting term. HM? How did I fall asleep here? Right? Someone kept drinking until he was wasted and thought he was sleeping in the clouds. Indeed drunk, he knows not the sky is afloat in the water. A boat laden with sweet dreams weighs down the Milky Way. Drunk, he knows not the sky is afloat in the water. A boat laden with sweet dreams weighs down the Milky Way. Brother casually brought up such a poem like that. What are you thinking of? Nothing. Oh, right, brother. Since you're awake, I have something important to tell you. Go ahead. What is it? Brother. Yesterday, M.O. Dong Fong told me everything. The one he ran into was that dragon beast. That one? Lost one horn, red in color, there's a high possibility that it's the same one. Great. That's great. It seems like we are truly fated after all. But it must have escaped quite far now. Even if we pursue it, it's most likely too late. No need to chase after it. Once the timing is ripe, we'll take his head. The Purple Moon Association will set a secret location for their gathering. 
and Baixiang Valley is quite close to the location the system has hinted at. Therefore, it will definitely show up there. Will it appear on its own? I've kept my sword sealed for nine years, all for this moment. I've learned a secret skill from the spirit, giving all my experience points for it every month. If I unsheathe my sword after accumulating nine years of hate, even I don't know what will happen. I'll let you live just a little longer. For now, I'll increase my favorability with Jiang Xingyan first. In this life, I no longer have any reason to hold back. Do you want to drink fish soup? Huh? You're making it? Of course. From now on, every meal will be personally cooked by me. Eh? Is this the New Year's? How rare of me to have such a great time drinking with sect leader Lu yesterday. But that's all there is to it. I'll take my leave today. Senior, are you there? Sect leader has cooked up some fish soup and invited for you to join in. Hi. I don't enjoy normal delicacies. I might not be used to what you guys normally eat. Therefore, no thanks. Sect leader said if I can't get you to join, then Xiao Chiu won't be eating his cooking for a month, senior, please. As thanks for drinking with me yesterday, I suppose I'll go. It's just normal cooking, there's nothing special about it. Ooh. It's fish soup personally cooked by sect leader. Smells good. This scent, why is it so tempting? No snatching. Everyone has their own share. I'm sitting here. What a peaceful, happy sect. They're more like a family, even. While the scent is appealing, the taste may not be so. Oh well, I'll give it a try. You're here. Quickly, sit down. The fresh fish soup will be served right away. Okay. Sect leader. Xiao Chiu wants some too. The guest first. Thanks. There's nothing special about it. It's just a normal bowl of fish soup. Try it. And see if my cooking suits your palate. In my previous life, I learned cooking especially for you. I've mastered perfectly what your taste is like. Does it suit your tastes? Oh, one more bowl, please. Sure. And with that, Jiang Xinyan continued to live at M.O. Sect for the next few days. Initially, it was Xiao Qiu who invited her over for meals, but she eventually began arriving early on her own and waited for food to be served. Time to eat. Time to eat. Sect leaders personally cook meals. Why is brother so diligently cooking? Why is he doing this for? There's something unusual about this. Is it because of that great cultivator? One only knows how to smirk, the other is so cold it's freezing, they're completely different. Wait. I understand now. I know. This is it. Brother is doing this for me, giving his all to make sure this great cultivator stays behind. After all, I'm the one who needs a great cultivator's teachings the most in M.O. sect. Brother's efforts cannot be disappointed just like this. What's wrong with Domley? I already have max 10 charm stat points, how can I get any more handsome? A man who knows my taste and my thoughts. As expected, this is what many people commonly refer to as a soulmate. Lu Chao Ge did not know he had become her soulmate. Since we're still waiting for the meal, let me drink a little first. Wait. This is a vermilion bird fruit. If it doesn't taste good after adding a few drops to spring slumber, feel free to beat me up. Drink up. Once you've tasted it, your admiration for me will increase. This is all a symbol of my love. Indeed, it tastes much better now. And so, it's true that the more you want something, the harder it is for it to come true. Ugh. This technique is outrageous. Although the effect is obvious, isn't this too painful? That group of heavenly blessed kids are talking again? Since there's nothing to do, let me go get some info about the Purple Moon Association for free. 
Let me see what they're talking about first. Dark, do you guys like to eat Chinese chives pockets? Heaven, yes, earth, same, gold, same. Earth, do you guys like to eat salted egg yolk pastry? Heaven, yes, earth, same, gold, same. Are you guys really the main characters of this world? What kind of crap are you guys talking about? Shouldn't you all talk more about the important matters in the cultivation world? Seems like you guys need my guidance. None, how much do you all know about the Purple Moon Association? He's here. Finally. Is this the guide's test for us? I have to answer it seriously. Dark, Purple Moon Association is one of the oldest demonic cultivation organizations. It's known that they existed centuries ago. Dark, this organization has always been mysterious. Their history is even older than the top four sex. Oh, this kind of thing persisted so long too? Come to think of it, the guild that was chasing after Purple Moon Association in my past life, it's fight-loving guild, right? A group of guys who thought they're rich enough and used their assets to challenge my allowance. At that time, they even tried to recruit me. But how is it possible for me to work for anyone? After things got awkward with them, there was basically no more news about the Purple Moon Association. The Earth, Purple Moon Association's members have a crazed admiration for the association. They firmly believe that the Purple Moon contains incomparable power. As long as they own it and consume it, then they will be above all creations in the world. Aren't all of those obvious already? If the Purple Moon Association doesn't worship the Purple Moon, would they be worshiping the Blue Moon? Give me something more useful. Tools should be useful as one. Purple Moon Association's members have a grazed admiration for the association. They firmly believe that the Purple Moon contains incomparable power. As long as they own it and consume it, then they will be above all creations in the world. The guide is not satisfied with our answers and information. We have to quickly give him what he wants. Earth, actually. I also know the Purple Moon Association's big secret. A big secret? How big is it exactly? Earth, actually. I can't be sure either. It's only sort of like a guess. Earth, everyone here should already be aware of it. But Emperor Ching is half demon and half human. Talking about the obvious things again? Who doesn't know that? Earth, SIR guide, I don't know is what I'm about to say will be offensive, nor do I know if I should say it. This brat is worrying that I'm the descendant of Emperor Ching. After all, this wooden plate is part of Tian Yi Dao. Great job for thinking so far ahead. If so, then isn't this a golden chance for me? None, with Emperor Ching's reputation, of course I won't be offended by what others say. There might be people who criticize me, but ultimately I have the final say on who is right and wrong. That saying, how heroic. This isn't the kind of mindset that a normal person would have. We shouldn't have to worry about that since he had said that. Earth, as far as I know. The Emperor Ching has half-demon and half-human blood. Therefore, he also has a purple-colored heart. In other words, this Purple Moon Association is actually eyeing Emperor Ching's heart. Ha, nice. So those demon cultivators desire to taint and own the one and only Emperor Ching, who once saved the entire Tianxian world if any of them really succeeded, then things would turn really ugly. Since that person's power can save but also destroy the entire world. Since the Purple Moon Association has such a devious plan, it won't do if I simply let them do as they will. Let me add some difficulty to your gathering, he. None, Purple Moon Association will have a gathering once every three years. The next gathering will be in Dongji. None, that is all for today. Wovo, this bunch of heavenly chosen kids. What will they do after finding that out? News about the Purple Moon Association. Eradicating demon cultivators will be rewarded in our sect. Those guys even plan to taint Emperor Ching's heart. This Dongji, it's time to wipe them all clean. Being able to command these four people all by myself, this feeling sure is great. As expected, there are never too many tools to use. 
something like this, I should really do it more often. For now, I'll check my own strength first. If I want to flip the Purple Moon Association over, then I need to have more aces up my sleeves. My good brother, in just a few days, I'll see you again. Let me see just how much you have changed. BU1, blue ranked, lower tier, has been sealed. Contains forbidden skill inside. There's no need to have you rank up right now. Just stay as a blue rank. I need to accumulate my experience points until the new players arrive. This restriction has been properly kept for nine years. Once you're unsheathed, what kind of surprise will you bring me? 189 days till beta testing. It's not far from now, but there's something else I need to do first. Brother, come in. This brat, does she spread out her detection skill at all times? I wanted to play the role of a bad guy for a bit too. I lost my chance. Brother, why do you always come when I've finished my bath? He, it's all just a coincidence. What is it again this time? I want to ask you one last time, you really don't want to follow me to the training grounds? Once is enough. I don't want to waste spiritual stones. It's just mere spiritual stones. It's not like we can't afford them. Brother, as the sect leader, you still don't know how much the expenses costs. MO sect might have few members, but the amount of spiritual stones spent each month is also quite a lot too. Let's just talk about. Stop right there. If you're not going, then I'll go alone. Fram grounds. What is called the training grounds is actually a location specially made by the sword sect in Ching Zhou. In simpler words, it's a place built for disciples to train and break through. But it's for first, second, and third ranked. There are only three levels of tests. There are traps, monsters, and other elements in it. There's even a ranking for how fast you can clear it, which brings benefits to those who train there. Furthermore, with rankings, won't it inspire some competition? The only downside is aside from the sword sect disciples, others will need to pay to train there. But there's something I want to ask you. Which rank did you break through when you went there two years ago? Brother, the three levels tests are the same. It's just the difficulty difference. From the perspective of saving money, you should directly go and try out the third rank one. So you're already third rank two years ago? Oh no. I slipped up. Putting aside the rank matter, don't tell me you didn't even go and take a look at the sword monument in the central area, right? We spend money to train there. Of course I did go and see. That's the first generation sword sovereign sword slash mark. Tian Xian World's last ninth rank cultivator. Many people went to train there only for that mark. That one sword slash mark pushed many people to break through. That sect shouldn't have taken it out to share it with everyone. If it's me, I would have hidden it well and only for my eyes to see. You're short-sighted, that's why you would only stay in the mountains while others open up a whole sect. They're not looking for personal benefits, nor is it for their sword sex longevity, but instead to pass down the legacy of sword manship. This kind of goal is something I respect a lot too. That sword monument, I should go and take a look too. Furthermore, there should be my name as one of those heaven chosen ones on the rankings. Only then will the new players know of MO sect when they arrive. Or else, they won't ever hear of us, MO sect at all, after all. We are at the dead bottom of all. Right. You. B brother, what is it? Brother, you can't have. Broken through the fourth rank, right? Ha ha ha, how, how can that be? I only reached third rank two years ago, ha 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 ha. Really? Really? Really, really? Fine. What was I thinking? I can't treat brother with such disrespect next time. We're siblings after all. Let's go. Time to get my name on that ranking list today. Hmm? Where are you going? Sword sex training grounds. A place like this must be not interesting to her. That's why I didn't inform her. 
I'll go with you. She seems cold and the type to hate the crowd. Oh, I know now. She's not interested in the training grounds. She's interested in me. He's good looking indeed. What's wrong? Is there something on my face? No. As expected of me. This is the appeal of 10 charm stat points. How rare of her to steal glances at me. How about I talk to her more? Do you think I'll be able to pass the test tomorrow? Naturally. Then, which spot do you think I will land in the rankings? What are you thinking, asking me like this? I don't like to play mind games, so I'll just answer honestly. Of course, the higher the better. All right, then the higher the better it is. Sword Sec Training Grounds Watervale Cave Watervale Cave, I like it. Fellow Taoist, let's go in together. Okay. Please. The power of water? Are you a test taker? Yes, wait. Great cultivator. Chun Chiu Mountains Jiang Xinyan Greet Senior. Ancient tree? What a guy. I can't even see through the level of a tree spirit that guards the gates. I suppose it's higher than fifth rank. Even higher than Jiang Xinyan. This is sword sex strength. Who's entering the training grounds? If you're a disciple under the lead of the sword sect, you get a 50% discount. Eh? Who said that? This person is so good looking. M.O. Sex Sect Leader, Lu Chaoga. A mere second rank can also become sect leader? He became a sect leader at such a young age. How capable? Your 50% discount, does it still count? Yes. Yes. Hey, junior sister, ah. Uh, he smiled at me. He smiled at me. Sect leader Lu, here please. Fellow Taoist, please wait for me here for a while. I'll be back in a bit. No worries. Be back in a bit? With that kind of strength, I bet you can't even pass the first stage. What's the point of looking handsome? My name is Chen Mingru. Sect Leader Lu can just call me Mingru. There's a transportation array for the first stage there, MHM, okay. Good luck, Sect Leader Lu. As expected, there's not a single person in the world who doesn't fall for charms. Even if there is, it's only because they haven't met me yet. Have I arrived? A wooden puppet, the first stage is a test of your sword aura. The stronger it is, the more the puppet will fall behind. 30 degrees back will be considered a pass. If I remember correctly, you, you only needed one slash for the wooden puppet to fall completely to the ground. His sword aura overwhelmed the puppet for seconds before it bounced back. Such an extraordinary sight is what caused Yu Yu to be so well known in the younger generation. To what extent will you achieve? I'm curious. You're going to fail. This kind of test? What a waste of my time. He's not unsheathing his sword? What an idiot. So cool. He's so agile. Ha ha ha. I'm dying of laughter. There's such a weak aura that exists. Eh, it shouldn't be like this. H.M.? How, he was able to cut down the special spiritual wood. Interesting. To the next stage. T2 Strong, with just a wave of his sword, he broke the best record set in the past. Who exactly is that guy? That one slashes power, how can that be the level of someone below third rank? Just a wave? That wooden puppet is made from a special kind of spiritual wood. It's not something a simple slash can break. Congratulations for passing the first stage. You've gained 10,000 EXP points. That one slash earlier on contained my sword aura, the power of water and sword intent. They told me I was only going to endure being beaten up. Why did I have to die here too? This is the so-called, easily achieved great success on the surface, but behind the scenes, a lot of effort went into it. 
he actually formed his sword intent. Sword cultivation, sword intent, the saber cultivation, saber force, spear cultivation, spear spirit, these can only be learned when you're above the third rank. But he is only in the second rank. Even the senior ancient tree is surprised? With its identity, it should have seen everything in the world already. Jiang Xinyan was right. The ancient tree was rumored to have been planted personally by Emperor Qing and has experienced ancient events. Yet, in this moment, it also can't help but stare right at Lu Chaoge's sword, Bi Yuan. Is this the second stage? It's within a painting? As expected. That guy entered the second stage of the training grounds. The test this time is completely different from the first. Hey, this time we'll finally see him shed tears. I really want to see that handsome guy's wet look from falling into the water. It seems like if I were to walk on this path in between the two stone mountains, this test will end. So, this is the gravity test, huh? Humph. The first test was assessing his control of spiritual power. But if his spiritual power isn't firm enough, then it'll be drained by the stone's gravity. Ah, even though he's facing a challenge, he's still so handsome. Many people from the third ranks can't pass this stage either. Good luck, Sir Sect Leader. I was thinking how hard it would be. But it's only a gravity that is stronger than the usual by four to five times. It's just draining a little of my spiritual energy. Ah, uh, I really feel like running through this. There's nothing I can do since I have so much spiritual energy. How is that possible? That guy is getting through it like he's shopping on the streets? So handsome. Sir Sect Leader. So strong and handsome. Is he cheating? I got through it so quickly. How boring. Can't they give me something more impactful? Oh, forest and mountains breeze. How comfortable. These leaves are strange. Here it comes. The forest of blades. All the leaves will turn into blades, showering with a rain of attacks. Sir Sect Leader, be careful. No one can safely walk out of there. Even senior brother Yu had injuries when he got out. A frontal attack? Aside from that one slash earlier, I've yet to see any of your attacks. Perfect timing. Let me see what techniques you'll use to face this. So it's a test on sword techniques. How unfortunate that mine are. Only normal attacks. Level 1 normal attacks level. Sword technique, two types of normal sword wielding. Each slash will deal 150% to 200% damage. One simple slash, a fast attack that deals 150% damage. One serious slash, a slow attack that deals 200% damage. A mysterious technique I picked up from the little spirit. Even the system labeled it as level question mark back then. For the sake of leveling up one level, I used up 100,000 EXP points. Even though a purple rank usually requires only 30,000 to 50,000 points. Well, it's really worth it though. Who can withstand my slashes now? What the? He's completely unharmed. M Monster. Who could have thought that his sword technique was so strong? No tricks, no shortcuts. It was as simple as slashing with his sword. Is this his swordsmanship? Unbelievable. I only realized after getting close, but this mountain is actually a demonic beast. This guy is quite the trouble now. Not even a leaf would float. Something's weird with this water. Humph. This river water will sap away your spiritual energy the second you touch it. Furthermore, there's a barrier set on top so don't even think about flying across. To get through this stage, you need to walk through it step by step. It's a huge hassle. This guy definitely can't win over Senior Brother Yu Yu. Senior Brother Yu Yu once slashed a path open with his sword. That slash was so magnificent, I can still remember it clearly today. 
Quickly, go forth. Cross the river. The wetter your clothes become, the better. If some fishes can slice open those robes, that would be great too. Ah, the more I think about it, the more excited I get. Move aside. This? The hell? The beautiful sight of a man splashed by water is gone. Hee hee, all the water in this world must heed my command. Wherever I want the water to flow, then it shall flow there. With the looks of it, this ancient tree only lost composure over his swordsmanship. But why is that so? Are there other secrets about him? So, this demonic beast, what is the test? This stage tests your sword heart. It's not something you can brute force through. That stone wall is the beast of fears. It won't attack you, but it will enlarge the fears in a human's heart. Senior you, you had to, at that time. Beast of fears doesn't enlarge what causes you fear, but what you are most terrified of. It can be emotions, humans, beasts, anything at all. Sect Leader Lu, everyone has something they are afraid of. What are you scared of? I'm coming in. How is he, so calm? And he came out so fast too, this can't be. What exactly did he see? Everyone has their fears. He can't be an exception. Did he cheat again? What's going on? What exactly did he see? Past. Could it be that his heart and cultivation are firm and pure? Could he possibly be what the legends described as unchanging even in the face of a landslide? He actually passed. As expected of me. I saw nothing at all. After all, throughout the entire world, there's not a single thing I'm afraid of. Wait a second, what did Dawn Lee see when she went through here? I can't recall it at all. You've successfully passed and gained 30,000 EXP points. It seems like I'm not mindful enough of my sister. I should care about her more from now on. Yeah, next time. He's here. He's finally here. Another different location? What kinds of tricks are there? Strange, there's only one mirror here. Could they want me to admire my own looks? Attractive indeed, as expected of me. What does that mean? Are you trying to ruin my face in this stage? Interesting. So this stage is meant for me to win against myself. If that is the case, then this will be simple. I could have leveled up just to win against you, but that'd be too lowly of me to do so. This is the difference between us. Although our strength is the same, using the right technique at the right time will determine someone's true strength. My apologies, but you're only like me, but you're not actually me. Spiritual wind technique activated. Mo sect, Lu Chaoga passed. To think it was so easy for him, unbelievable. Ancient tree senior. Mo sect, Lu Chaoga, second rank in cultivation, takes the first position in the ranking boards of the new rising stars. Top 1. The first and third rank ranking boards are taken by Senior Brother Yu Yu. He didn't join the second one since he deemed it unnecessary. First rank, Yu Yu, Li Pan Yo, Zhang Erguo, Zhu San Gui, Nyo Sai Hua. Second rank, Lu Gao Ge, Li Pan Yo, Zhang Erguo, Zhu San Gui, Nyo Sai Hua. Third rank, Yu Yu, Li Pan Yo, Zhang Erguo, Zhu San Gui, Nyo Sai Hua. Furthermore, this sect leader actually won by half the amount of time it took the second place to pass. M.O. Sect, a mere lower hundred sect, to have hidden such potential. Frightening, so frightening. When I first met sect leader Lu, I knew he wasn't just an average cultivator. What? You were clearly charmed by his looks, okay? How strange, what is this feeling? Joy? But why would I be happy for someone else? 
maybe because I see him as my soulmate. Congratulations, you've successfully passed the training grounds. There's no notification on rewards, which means the system will only give the final reward within. The Visual Sword Monument Visual Sword Monument, the sword mark? This was left behind by the first generation sword sovereign. If you're a sword cultivator, staring at this mark for longer than three breaths time, and you will realize how it's so extraordinary. Some people broke through on the spot here. Some people have received enlightenment. And some sharpened their sword hard here. What will Lu Chaga gain from here? HM? This mark. Why is it? Isn't this from my normal attack? HM? Subconscious world, senior? Little girl, how did you get to know him? Senior, that would be a long story to tell. It started from a deviant beast. Jiam Sinyan gave a serious explanation on how he met Lu Chaoga. After spending some time with him, I feel really comfortable around him and I see him as my soulmate. Just a soulmate? Yes, senior. I regard him as a soulmate. Why is the ancient tree senior acting weirdly? Sinyan, hurry and find your true love too. Basking in love is a great thing. Deacon Jiang. Oh, Sinyan. Love can not only nurture your Tao heart, but also your Tao body. The senior is acting like those guys. Little child, come to realize your own feelings soon. With time, you might not be worthy of him anymore. Senior thinks so highly of him? To be able to be chosen, he must have his reasons for it. He won't be just a normal person from now on out. Chosen? What does that mean? Senior, what exactly did you want to tell me? Normal attack, why would it be that technique? So, the first generation sword sovereign knows how to use that technique too? Isn't that too big of a coincidence? Something's fishy. Little spirit gave this technique to me. Could she be related to the first generation sword sovereign? Not only does it have a ton of Purple Moon Association badges, a huge amount of skills and techniques, her skills and strength are a mystery, and now she might be related to the first generation Sword Sovereign. He he he, it does feel great to know I'm taken care of by someone great. Since it's a technique used by the first generation Sword Sovereign, then it's fine even if it takes up a lot of EXP points. After all, strength is only temporary. To act cool is eternal. System is currently evaluating your performance. Note, it will affect your final reward criteria. Your grade is S. Grade S? I've never heard of such a grade in passing a test in my previous life. What will it give? Grade S reward to receive one out of the three inheritance passed down from the first generation sword sovereign at random as well as some other special items. Holy? Urgent notice. Due to the fact that your current condition clash with the first generation Sword Sovereign's inheritances, you can only choose one of the two options. Are you? Notice, as compensation, you may receive more purchasing vouchers. Doing fine? The first generation Sword Sovereign's legacy. They should be more or less the same, right? Which should I choose? The male on left. The female on right. Then left it is. Slowed. Sounds, purple rank top grade sword technique. You've received the first generation sword sovereign's inheritance, sword technique slowed sounds. Do you wish to learn it now? Purple rank top grade item. It's one step before the orange grade. Ed, wait. In the game, wasn't this you use ultimate skill? He, doesn't that mean from now on? Senior brother Chowga, receive my strongest skill. Heh, this venerable one knows it too. It's only 50,000 EXP points. I'll learn it. Slowed sounds, doesn't mean this technique is really slow. It's actually because it's really fast. The sword slashes first, before the sounds hit. Slowed sounds can be used in a combo with normal attack. I understand. 
it can make the slashes even faster. Each slash will even bring impact. Little you, you, you're done for. Oh right, you said there was something else too? This special items will be displayed soon. You only have 10 minutes to choose. It will count as giving up your chance if you exceed the time. Grade S's rewards are all rare items. Do I still need to choose? An adult's choice would of course be I want them all. Blue grade skill, level up voucher flaws can be exchanged with 50,000 EXP points. A random stat increase can be exchanged for 200,000 EXP points. Specific stat increase point can be exchanged for 500,000 EXP points, but all of these will add up to 750,000 EXP points. If it was a normal person, this would be a huge amount. Taking them all in might be too much for them. But for me, I've been suffering from being unable to spend my EXP points for 20 years. I'll compensate for all of them today. 750,000 EXP points only. I won't even blink. Blue rank skill, level up voucher incomplete isn't so useful. I'll just treat it as a collection. Then, let's see what a random stat increase point will give me. Swordsmanship talent, archer talent, endurance, stamina, spear talent, physique. This is divine consciousness. With this, my divine consciousness will increase its scope, and by extension, my spiritual sensitivity will increase too. Huh? Ancient Tree Senior reacted. Seems like fellow Taoist Lu has broken through. He seems to always bring surprises. With time, you might not be worthy of him anymore. What's going on? Why is my mind thinking of those things? Not bad, not bad. My divine consciousness has increased quite a bit. There are more places I can access now. Sensitivity has also increased a whole lot. Next is the specific stat increase. But, for something like this, what should I choose? As a sword cultivator, of course it's. Swordsmanship talent. Lu Chauga, human, Corbone, 1, can be leveled up, max 10, swordsmanship talent, 3, luck. 3.1415926, forever stagnant, can't be leveled up, charm, 10, maxed. It can increase 10% of my attributes with just one point. Indeed the best stat increase. And after reaching three points. Congratulations, you've reached Sword Heart Transparency. What's wrong, Ancient Tree Senior? Is there something odd going on? That MOSEC leader, could he? Sword Heart Transparency Sword Heart Transparency? How can that be? Even the Sword Sovereign only achieved it when he broke into the fourth rank. Why is it impossible? Sect Leader Lu is that extraordinary after all. Such a young and handsome sect leader like him, he's obviously someone chosen by the heavens. After all, when we first saw him, our ears were filled with the sounds of a jade pot shattering into pieces, as if something was flowing out nonstop. Fervent ended here, indeed, that's love. After meeting him once there'll be no regrets in life. That sect leader Lu is only a second rank, but he achieved sword heart transparency. Doesn't that mean he was stronger than sword sovereign when he was in the same rank? Such a strong swordsman. Terrifying. Truly terrifying. What's going on? My spiritual sword, this feeling. It's loathing, and... That guy's sword is making our swords afraid. When the sword heart transparency is achieved, it will awaken a supernatural power, bringing about a series of changes to its surroundings. What exactly did he awaken? Who would have thought that my innate supernatural ability would be this? Supernatural, the sword cuts the body. The heart cuts the soul, you can cast a special power on the sword blade, dealing damage to divine consciousness, spirituality, weapon spirit, or any formless things. Once the formless things get cut down, it will be difficult for them to recover. Now, my normal attacks are not just critical, but they can even cut down any spiritual things. Hey, this ability is tied to the user's divine consciousness strength. 
Seems like if I get the chance in the future, I have to develop this special attribute. But come to think of it, the sword monument's normal attack, that technique is given by Little Ancestor, then who exactly is Little Ancestor? She can't be the first generation sword sovereign herself, right? This doesn't make sense. The first generation sword sovereign is a human being, that's confirmed. But that means she has to be related to the first generation sword sovereign in some way. I wonder if that ancient tree knows the little ancestor or not. Oh right, what kind of monster was the little ancestor then? That brat. When is he coming here again? He's out. He's out. He's smiling at us. The genius who surpassed the sword sovereign is smiling at us. Such a handsome genius is smiling at us. This is bad. I can't stand properly anymore. Not bad. Once the new players have entered, these ranking boards will be useful. At that time, they will be so shocked that their jaws will drop and happily work for me. I've kept you waiting too long. It's not long. It was really quick. Really quick? I don't feel happy to hear that somehow. You are pretty good. Thank you for the praise, senior. To gain a lot of reputation points here, I'll need to depend on this ancient tree. Maybe he really looks up on me? Young man, I have a request for you. Please say it, senior. Is the one who passed down that swordsmanship to you still alive? Yes. Even though she's living in a grave. Can I ask you to invite her here so I can meet her? I'm afraid I can't, ancient tree senior. Her situation is quite unusual right now and is unable to come here. She's living in a coffin. I haven't even seen her real face. Fine, forget it. As long as she's alive, all's well. That tone of his really does sounds like an old person. Could it be that we're not referring to the same person? This junior like to confirm with Ancient Tree Senior if the one we're talking about is the same person. Please let me know her name. Subconscious World, he's called Lu Li the Bizarre Lu Li. Lu Li? Face as far as I can remember, there's no one that I know who is named Lu Li in my previous life. But the Ancient Tree Senior treats this person with such respect, they can't be just a normal person. Is Lu Li really her? But that name isn't quite like a female's. Maybe we're not talking about the same person. You don't have to pay too much attention to it. But, in this marriage relationship, I agree to it. Little friend Lu, let's play a game between the two of us. How about it? Ancient Tree Senior, please go ahead and explain it. I was watching you go through the stages, but not once has your sword been unsheathed. It's hard for me not to be curious. This is my branch. Its strength is stronger than that of the puppet in the first stage. If you can leave behind a mark, you'll pass the test. If you can do it, I'll give the two of you a small gift. How about it? Sure. Huh? I have one too. Wait. Sect Leader Lu, your sword. You're still not unsheathing it? That's Ancient Tree Senior's new branch. It's not the right time yet. Slowed sounds serious slash. H how fast, sword intent, that was sword intent, I isn't that the technique that Senior Brother Yu learned from the sword monument? He's only in second rank, yet he learned it too? That technique, he must have been recognized by the sword monument earlier too. No wonder he passed the stages with such ease. But even if he's a young genius, how can he not show some face to the ancient tree senior? Ancient tree senior might get angry. He only asked him to leave a mark, but he directly cut it off. Ha ha ha. You're even stronger than he was in the past. The him that ancient tree senior is talking about, it can't be, the first generation sword sovereign. The running water does not strive for the first, the contention is the continuous flow. The running water does not strive for the first, the contention is the continuous flow. 
what he means is that he doesn't care about winning against anyone. Instead, he wants to keep on improving on his own path. What I want now is not to win against the Lu Li. What I want is to climb the Kuen Luen Mountains and consume the Jade Sprout. And to live as long as the heavens and earth, to shine as bright as the sun and moon. You are quite interesting. I'll give them to you then. Thanks, senior. This is a top grade crafting item. I'll make a wooden puppet of it for Hei Ting and the others to use. Aside from that, I promised another gift for you too. Is this going to increase my romance luck? These two peach blossom flowers will react to each other and help you out if either of you is in danger from now on. Peach blossom, so that's how it is. Ancient Tree Senior is trying to match make them. A love-hate relationship between the sect leader of one of the hundred bottom-ranked sects and one of the great cultivators of Chun Chiu Mountain? If a woman is older by three years, then the husband will have a rich life. If a woman is older by five years, then the husband will have a great life. But if a woman is older by three thousand years, then the husband will have a divine life. Oh, to be spoiled and sponsored by a rich older woman. How nice. Why isn't it me who gets to match make with sect leader Lu? In my previous life, because we were tied down by our teacher-student relationship in my past life, the system would inform me when there was any danger she was in. But most of the time, it was Master who protected me. So in this life, let me be the one to protect you instead. This time, those sword sect disciples should be normal, right? Yu Yu, Li Nan Wei, and that Chen Xiao, none of them did their job in promoting my reputation. Reputation points from Sword Sect, I must have it. From earlier on, the atmosphere has become a little awkward, I have to think of something. Daoist friend, I still have a place I would like to go to. Are you willing to go with me? MHM. Huh? Where? What's wrong? Are there any troubles within your sect that worries you? In the past, you were pestered by many cultivators who amplified lust. You had no choice but to descend from the mountain because of that. I know all of that. MHM Daoist friend, what exactly is love and like? Why countless people in the world so obsessed about it? Could it be this time, she left the Chan Chiu mountain because she was frustrated by those pursuers and even had unnecessary troubles? I don't know what it means, but I do know that when someone doesn't have anyone they like, that's when they're at their coolest. Cool. Daoist friend, I've told you so many things already. How about you tell me your frustrations at Chun Chiu Mountain too? Sai. Chun Chiu Mountain's cultivation amplifies one human desire. But for those who amplifies their desire for lust, once they failed in their pursuit of it, they will lose their rationality. Then slander and rumors will start to spread. Those people said I have a cold personality. That I'm hard to get along with and I'm completely unsuitable to be a Taoist partner at all. How laughable. What right do those bastards have to talk about my people? Who do they think they are? They better don't let me catch them. Or I'm gonna beat them up one by one. They have never properly spent time with you before. What right do they have to say it's hard to get along with you? On the other hand, I think you're not only easy to get along with, but I also feel really at ease when I'm around you. Taoist friend. Have you ever heard of the saying, the grapes are sour when you can't reach them? The grapes that they can't eat, I'll have them. It's especially sweet. Sword sec training grounds. We'll leave after dropping you off here, senior brother. Since we're here already, let's go and pay some respects to the ancient tree senior. Sect leader Lu is really outstanding. Who would have thought that he was so extraordinary? Second rank, Lu Chao Ge, it really is him. Fellow disciples, could you please tell me everything you know about this person? I'll do it. Senior brother Yu Yu, let me tell you. Blah blah blah, eh? Okay. HM? Hmm? No. It can't be? 
How can it be? Senior Brother Chowga, you, you, lied to me? Why does Senior Brother you, you have such an expression? Did he get discouraged by the story? That can't be. Senior Brother you, you is also considered someone chosen by the heavens. These average disciples completely didn't understand. When Yu Yu was young, he once received an importation of wisdom from Chowga. Do you know why you're not my opponent? Senior Brother Chowga, W.I.? I'll only say it once. This is my secret belief, and I'll only tell you this. So remember it well. Okay. I'll always bear it in my mind. If there's no woman within your heart, then you will naturally be outstanding at swordsmanship. If there's no woman within your heart, then you will naturally be outstanding at swordsmanship. Why? He he he, why is it that you clearly said something like that, yet you have a Taoist partner now? Traitor. Senior brother Yu Yu, I remember you once told about a mysterious senior brother before from a sect under the lead of the sword sect. Could that person be sect leader Lu? Of course it's not. How can that be? Don't spout such nonsense. Don't guess randomly. It's actually not? So there's another talented cultivator out there? That mysterious senior brother might be standing on the same grounds as sect leader Lu, right? With that, MOSEC's reputation value increase has once again been forcefully stopped by a certain Mr. Chen. Achu. Is the gush of the wind too strong? No, maybe someone is calling me handsome behind my back. Daoist friend, the Flying Bird City that you mentioned, we're here. Flying Bird City, we're finally here. Why do you want to come to this little city? You'll understand eventually. Even if I want to explain it to you now, you won't understand anyway. After all, who would believe that I'm here to snatch the beginner's mission? He he he. Flying Bird City, during the beta test stage, it's one of the 10 beginner cities to start in. Which is also where I started out in my previous life. I know it better than anyone. Furthermore, this beginner's mission will cause the deaths of many. Cough, cough. Just one more stroke and the array will be completed. Cough, cough, cough. Cough, cough, cough. It's completed. I'm sorry. I just want to survive. This array will steal your vitality away, but your lives will continue within my body forever. Cough, 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 W what's going on, what went wrong? Why didn't I absorb the flying bird's life force? Instead, they're absorbing the surroundings life force. Shit, those birds will definitely hurt the people. It's not my intention. Hey, look at those birds. Why do they seem a little different from usual, strange? The trees around them are wilted. What's going on? I didn't intend to harm others. I didn't intend to harm others. Hurry up and run. Those birds are not normal. Run into the city. Ah. These birds are pecking me. They're trying to eat humans. Help. It's not my fault. I can't be blamed. It doesn't have anything to do with me. I'm someone at the brink of his death. I'm almost going to die anyway. Scram to the side. H he is. Jixian? Was it you who triggered the flying birds to make such a mess? To survive on your own, you drew that evil spell array, but it went wrong, causing the flying birds to go on a rampage. You're almost dying, so of course it has nothing to do with you. But what about those who are still alive? After you die, why would you even care about them anymore? How annoying. You might be dying. But what about those people who are still not dead? What would they do? 
Furthermore, in my previous life, the protection array that protected the villagers only activated on its own against these flying birds after it reached the state of full blood up until the beta testers players arrived. At that time, as a beta player, I didn't know what the state of full blood meant for. At the same time, I did not care at all about the death counts that reached over three digits back then. All I knew was that killing these flying birds would give you experience points. That was all. Daoist friend, there's a protection array in Flying Bird City that can protect the villagers. I do not know how to activate it, but do you? There's someone else? I do. AA Great Cultivator? A speck of dust from the changing of generations, when landing on someone, will be a huge mountain. But today, this venerable one is going to remove the mountain. Why did those birds suddenly go crazy? If those creatures broke into city, the consequences are unthinkable. The entire flying bird city will be destroyed. Thank you, Lord Cultivator. If you did not arrive in time, then we'd all be done for. No need to thank me. But even though the protection array can stop them, for us to earn a living, we need to leave the city to pick fruits, that's right. If we can't solve this bird calamity, then we'll die from starvation at some point. Please help us, Lord Cultivator. He only told me to activate the array. He'll do it himself. This bird calamity, I'll solve it. W.Y. are there so many of them? Can that cultivator handle it? We should get him to hide inside for a bit too. Maybe we can plan this out. I believe in him. A mere second rank like him, if the great cultivator doesn't get involved, then he can't possibly handle this huge amount of those birds on his own. How can I get rid of them if they're flying in the air? The town's gate doesn't exist for you bunch to raid the town either. This is the dead end for you all. Get down here. H. How is this possible? It's the power of heaven and earth. That guy actually awakened such ability. A rainy day, to me, it is considered my territory. The power of water's uses are far beyond your imagination. The power of heaven and earth might be amazing, but the spiritual power consumption is higher too. He's using his power of heaven and earth so frequently, his spiritual power will run out soon. My spiritual power ran out. But, I am a chosen one by the heavens too, you know. Level up. He broke through, to think he managed to break through during a battle. Putting aside the power of heaven and earth, he managed to break through in a battle. Who exactly is this guy? Since spiritual power is no longer an issue, let's try mixing sword intent with the power of heaven and earth then. Sword intent, he has sword intent too. A mere second rank. Annihilated these T thousands of birds. Is this the legendary power of heaven and earth? You can't be saved anymore. I know. But after seeing how gallant you are, I suddenly regret it a lot. A cultivator should never bring disaster to the common people. And instead every cultivator should be like you. To be a hero to them. His blood vessels have completely shattered. He can't be saved anymore. No, he saved himself. The flying bird calamity may have been stopped, but the blood array is still there. For the matter to be truly solved, we must also destroy the source. Let's go to the source of all this. I wonder where those two cultivators are from. We don't even know the names of our saviors. They're truly such a divine couple. It'd be great if we could learn their names. I'll surely spread their names far and wide. No need to rush. 
I'll tell you the name of this venerable one later. After all, MO6 reputation value and the recruitment of new B players will have to depend on you a lot. Is Daoist friend forcefully suppressing his rank? Earlier on, I saw that you were breaking through nonstop. That's how you could get rid of those flying birds so easily, right? Have you ever heard of any news about the Sword Sovereign? It was said that he was once able to break through many layers at once too. Such news have spread far and wide, so of course I have heard of it. But why did you mention it now? If I say that I can do it too, will you believe me? It's just a joke, don't take it so seriously. H.M., fortunately those birds didn't ruin all of the fruits here. It's a little sour, but still bearable. Ancient Tree Senior, did you see anything in him? How many secrets does he carry, exactly? With time, you might not be worthy of him anymore. Jiang Xinyan started to become curious about Chaoga. And the early symptoms of a woman falling head over heels for a man is to become curious about him. The blood array, I found it. It can't be eaten. The corpse of the bird still has poison. This venerable one, sect leader of MO sect, Lu Chao Ge, has finished dealing with the flying bird calamity. The corpses of the birds here are not edible. Don't forget that. This venerable one, sect leader of MO sect, Lu Chao Ge, has finished dealing with the flying bird calamity. The corpses of the birds here are not edible. Don't forget that. This venerable one, sect leader of MO sect, Lu Chao Ge, has finished dealing with the flying bird calamity. The corpses of the birds here are not edible. Don't forget that. Thank you, MO sect cultivator, for the reminder. We will definitely remember MO sex grace. To think it's the MO sex sect leader who personally came to help us. No wonder it was so easily dealt with. Thank you, sect leader Lu. Thank you, sect leader Lu. If these flying birds aren't contaminated with poison, I'd really want to grill them up and have a bite. Using my special herbs and secret method of controlling the fire to let her have a taste of how great it is. He's still so meticulous. If not for his reminder, who knows how many people will fall victim to these poisonous corpses. Although I couldn't have her taste of it, at least the townspeople will remember M.O. Sex's name from now on. Although I can only gain reputation points now, once the new players enter, my name will definitely ring loudly in their ears. But Lu Chaoga did not realize that among the 10 cities set up for beta players, only Flying Bird City did not have a single monster, and a large team of 1,000 people, they will not find a single monster to grind with. The players who will spawn here could only depend on daily tasks to level up. A random beta player in Flying Bird City, do you know what my life was like during the beta testing? I had to pick fruits every day, day in and day out. Becoming a farmer in the game. That's my entire life. I almost forgot, the players won't have any monsters to grind with. Whatever. Even though they don't have monsters to fight, at least they can meet me. This venerable one is a chosen one by the heavens. Isn't that way better than those flying birds? You guys are truly a group of children chosen by God, me. Why are his expressions changing nonstop? Did he think of something amusing? What's going on? My wooden plate is reacting so strongly. It far exceeded when I received news from the main characters. Could it be that there's a new function unlocked? Divine consciousness, what kind of new ability would it be? How strange, why am I not feeling anything? Did it die on me? It's impossible for the wooden plate to die on anyone. While Lu Chaoga was unaware, a huge matter happened. Rewinding time back to an hour ago. The bird calamity that I've single-handedly caused will finally begin. All of this, in my eyes, is the future. Heaven's secret helper, the person with the strongest divine consciousness in the world, the person who activated the blood array and the selection of the flying bird city were both planned entirely by me. After all, I'm the one who carries out the orders of heaven. 
for someone nearing his death, when faced with a secret technique that could possibly prolong his life that came from a mysterious realm, who wouldn't waver? Unfortunately, I've tweaked it. I'm saved. As long as I can activate this array, I'll be saved. In the future I see, that near-death man is merely a tool for activating this calamity. How unfortunate for them to only be rotten chess pieces to me. As for my good chess pieces, I already have planned them out. My first plan, I planted a demon seed in that dark, mute child, and so many years have passed. He he he, the demon seed must have already grown. What's going on? Who's ruining the heaven's plans? It's them. A mere fifth rank great cultivator and another second rank. Could that great cultivator be an outsider as well as ruining the bird calamity and the heaven's plans? I won't believe it. If it's an outsider then it's impossible for me to see her future. If I can see it, then she's not one. H.M.? I can see the future of that great cultivator, then she's not an outsider. Could it be that second rank? Let me see. Ah, outsider. He's the outsider. Why? Everyone is just chess pieces. How did he jump out of the chessboard? Who is it? Those pair of eyes, that lotus flower, who is it? In the same moment those pair of jade green eyes appeared, Chowga's wooden plate vibrated. R forget it, maybe I have to level up more to be able to see the new ability. I'll treat it as a hint it has given me. Daoist friend, do you have anywhere else to go? No, let's go home. MHM. T that isn't my home. That's just your home. At the same time, in the MO sect, the people who stayed behind are guiding Xiao Qiu's cultivation. Hey. Ha. Sai, Master has gone to seclusion to who knows where. The young lord has also gone out on a trip to who knows where, most importantly. That senior who accompanied the young lord out. That posture, that body, it's no less than mine, a man and a woman alone. What if sparks flew? No, the young lord never got charmed by me. That senior's body. It's not much different as mine, right? What am I thinking of? How can I compare like this, unlike what I was taught, the young lord isn't in love with the body, he must be in love with that person's soul. And a little bit of the body too, perhaps? Senior sister. Ah. Uh, what is it? You surprised me. Senior, senior, what does men weigh more than women mean? Let's sell her. If we sold her, then our son would have the money to go to school. He only ripped off your new clothes. What about it? Senior sister? Senior brother, could you explain it to Xiao Qiu? I shouldn't have told her the story of the village lady losing her daughter. It's my fault. Older senior brother? What is it? An M.O. sect, the meaning of men weigh more than women is to let men carry the heavy things while women carry the light ones. Oh, so that's what it means. The old man did not realize that his good chess piece had already been ruined by Lu Chowga as well. It's been half a year since I visited. Senior Ning. No need for courtesy. Where's Chowga? Why isn't he here? To reply, Senior, my master is in seclusion while the sect leader has left the mountain to go to the training grounds. Seclusion? That little lass. Is it necessary to set up 13-fold restrictions for training in seclusion? You said Chowga went to the training grounds. Why didn't you guys go along with him? Sect leader said he has his own plans. Other plans? That probably means he was out of spiritual stones. Sai, that child. Why didn't he just ask from his Aunt Ning? 
Let me leave some spiritual stones behind before I leave this time. Senior Ning's aura is truly impeccable. The brothel keeper auntie once said that mature, peach-like women are the most attractive and deadly to men. If young lord likes big ones, then like Senior Ning. No, no, no. What was I thinking? But then again, the elder sisters back there said that men had all sorts of weird tastes. When doing that deed, some would yell, Auntie, sister-in-law, younger sister. Younger sister? It can't be, right? Furthermore, Master isn't comparable to me in that aspect. What are you doing? Nothing. Senior Ning, please, he. I can't do it anymore. I need to get some fresh air to clear out my mind. Ugh. It hurts so much, that guy. What exactly is he? What's going on? My eyes. The power that the heaven granted me, I'm blind. I only took a look at that guy, but I ended up being blind. I need to investigate properly. Who exactly is that guy? I won't let a second outsider exist. Heaven's Secret Tower, an information organization which branches throughout the Tianxian world. Tower Leader You got injured? Xian Ji, go and check this guy out for me. This is his portrait. To think such a handsome man exists in this world. Don't be blinded by his charms. Thoroughly check his background and everything. If not, you know the consequences. You may leave. Of course, I'll investigate thoroughly. She and G would really want to find out more about him too. System notification. A system notification? Open. System notice, 10 days left for players to arrive. 10 days. 10 days and the best tools will be coming. I've already set everything up. Now I just wait for them to be baited. Daoist friend, we've arrived at MO sect. Why is there no one to welcome us? They should be cultivating right now. Why is there no one? Why did I answer so naturally? MO sex matters shouldn't have anything to do with me. Divine consciousness. It turns out Aunt Ning came. Aunt Ning? Chowga. Aunt Ning. Long time no see. What good stuff have you brought over for me this time? All you think about are great items. Don't you even miss your Auntie Ning? Miss, of course I miss you. Unfortunately, I'm already an adult. I can no longer dive headfirst into those soft, plumpness. H.M.? Isn't this? I forgot to introduce to you. Aunt Ning, this is fellow Taoist Jiang from Chunqiu Mountain. D Taoist friend Ning. What's going on? We should be of the same seniority, but why am I so nervous? Oh my. Who would not know of the elder of Chun Chiu Mountain, Jiang Xinyan? We should be of the same seniority, but why is her expression as if she were meeting her partner's parents? Could it be the atmosphere between them? I see. He he he, these two really did get together. What senior sister? Call me aunt. He he he. Aunt Ning, do you have anything in mind to visit me? I wonder what Aunt Ning is thinking about. She's at the age where she enjoys playing Cupid. Cough, cough. Yes, I do indeed have some matters at hand. I received some items in our sect. I don't have any use for it, so I'll gift it to you. These are high-grade spiritual tree seeds. I know you were lacking, so I especially brought over a bag of it. High-grade spiritual tree seeds are really rare. Yet actually directly gifting a bag to us, high-grade spiritual tree seeds? Can it be eaten? Hey, don't brag about your identity as a great cultivator. Our Chauga also has a great cultivator looking after him. Those seeds are ancient tree seniors? Fifteen minutes ago, M.O. sect, within a certain hidden cave. 
a certain young lady who worked hard on suppressing her rank and preventing herself from breaking through. But this young lady isn't actually here. This is only an illusory image of her steady, mature self that she set up. Huff, huff, that was close. If that wave of spiritual energy earlier on were enlarged by tenfold, then I would have had one slash one hundred chance of failing at breaking through. I have been suppressing it for so many years. I couldn't hold it in anymore and finally broke through. I should be more careful from now on. All of you will personally understand what being mature means, huh? Brother and sister Jiang are back. Aunt Ning is here too. It's been three days, eleven hours, and forty-five minutes since I last saw brother. Brother. Sister Jiang. Aunt Ning. Eh? Such pretty peach blossom flowers. Brother, Sister Jiang, you. These peach blossom flowers aren't pretty at all. Dumbly. Damn it. What's going on? It feels like I was caught red-handed in the act. What a strange feeling, though. Only people flinging would feel this kind of strange feeling. Aunt Ning, you're here. It's fine to just visit us, but what gifts did you bring along, too? This girl, Dong Li. Young Lord and Senior John's relationship isn't so simple, but, but what does it matter? As long as I could be one of the Young Lord's women, then I, Luo Bing, will succeed. Cough, cough. Since everyone's here now, then why not just choose today to go plant these spiritual tree seeds? Sure. Yay. Let's go. MHM. You must have had great results from the training grounds. Just a little bit better than normal people. I've somewhat awakened the sword heart transparency, and I've also learned the sword sovereign slowed sound technique. Oh, and also, I've cleared the stages in about half the second place's time. You call that a little bit better than normal people? My MOSEC disciples, everybody should be able to achieve this. All of you, what do you say? Us, MOSEC disciples, are able to achieve that. Your children really did not disappoint you. Next day, Aunt Ning, do you really not want to stay a few more days? Aunt Ning isn't as free as you. There are still many things in the sect waiting for me to deal with. Oh, right. You, you asked me to pass along his greetings. Then, I'll trouble Aunt Ning to pass back my greetings too. I forgot to tell you that you, you broke through to fourth rank not long ago. It's great that you're improving fast, but it'd be bad if you became too arrogant. There aren't just one genius around. I'm almost there too. You're not even third rank. Yet you dare say you're almost there. Isn't it something that's bound to happen? Forget it. You, you actually asked me to pass on a question too. This boy. He really doesn't know how to be humble and low profile. Aunt Ning, why does that brat have so much to say? He asked you, now that the current him is in fourth rank, can he now take on your unsheathed sword? Is Uncle Yu Yu stronger than the sect leader now? How will he answer it? Then I'll trouble Aunt Ning once again to relay this message to him. I've sealed away my sword for ten years, and anyone below the fifth rank will be killed under my sword. Spiritual wind activated. Ten years, his determination is really amazing. As expected of young lord. So great. I want to say such great things like sect leader too. Ouch. Got it. I'll relay the exact words to him. Goodbye, Aunt Ning. Aunt Ning left behind some gifts in the bamboo shed for you guys. Remember to go take it. Gifts? I've caused you much inconvenience so far, Taoist friend. I'll take my leave here as well. Why you, are going back too? Yes. All right, then I wish you all the best. Thanks. That's right. Sister Jiang hasn't gotten that far with brother yet. Spending every day together is uncomfortable too. But it's different for me. I'm his sister, so I can be with him every day, he. Right, I've also left something in the bamboo shed. 
Please do go and take a look before you go to sleep, Taoist friend. Something? Before going to sleep? No, I can't look back. If I saw his face, then I won't feel like leaving anymore, Jiang Xinyan. What's wrong with you? You're always saying I'm cool, but I don't think the current me is cool anymore. Storage ring. Aunt Ning left behind spiritual stones and some materials for refining. With the spiritual stones alone, it's enough for all of our disciples to go to the training grounds and still have leftovers. As expected, mature women sure are extremely capable and resourceful. That'd be Sinyan's bamboo shit over there. But it's still some time away before I go to sleep. I'll go retrieve it in a little while then. For now, I still have something to do. Are you there? I went to the training grounds this time, MHM, I took first place, that's not really worth mentioning. Ah, uh, by the way, I also learned a new sword skill. Since I got that far, I casually awakened the sword heart transparency. Fine, such fine details are probably hard to understand with that little brain of yours. Let me tell you what concerns you instead. This trip down the mountain, I realized that the sword mark on the Sword Sovereign's monument was the sword skill you taught me last time. Where did you learn it from? You forgot? If so, then I can only give you even shocking news. Do you still remember this name? Luli the Bizarre Luli. There's a reaction. I remember. I remember now. I remember it now. What did you remember? I remember. Who is Lu Li? Then who is Lu Li? What is Lu Li? Lu Li is what? What were you saying earlier? I asked. Who exactly are you deaf? I can hear you. No need to be so loud. Why is this scene so familiar? Are you playing with me? I swear today I'm going to. Lu Li is the disciple of Emperor Qing. Emperor Qing's disciple. T that's not right. Emperor Qing had only five disciples in total. All of them were almighty cultivators above the ninth rank. Their reputations have spread far and wide even till today. But among the five names, there was no Lu Li. He was taken later by Emperor Qing and became his last disciple. Emperor Qing's last disciple? But in that ancient catastrophe, he and his five disciples vanished within that catastrophe. Could it be, Emperor Qing did not actually die in that catastrophe? Correct. Lu Li is his, hmm, it should be. It should be the disciple that he took in after that catastrophe, I think. You think? What do you know? Do you know anything else about Lu Li and Emperor Qing? I think so. I think I was with them for a very, very long time, but all those memories are so blurry now. I can only recall a forest filled with bamboo leaves. Bamboo forest? What kind of bamboo forest? The ancestor we pay tribute at home turns out to have stayed with Emperor Qing? So indirectly, doesn't that mean I'm also related to Emperor Qing? Not bad. Your voice is so soft. Did you not eat before coming? Since you can't hear me, then I'll just dig up your grave. Once I do that, you'll surely be able to hear it. Oh, I remember now. The bamboos are black. There's a little river too. Black bamboo, little river, it can't be such a coincidence, right? The black bamboo forest that I know is in the training grounds of the first generation sword sovereign. It shouldn't be so coincidental. The black bamboo forests in Tianxian world are countless. It can't be so coincidentally in sword sect, but come to think of it, this ancestor, what identity does it have? I'm really curious now. Have you remembered who you are? Nope. I still can't remember even my own name yet. So, how come you were only one little head before, but now you can more or less manifest a whole body? There should be some change, right? Because the limitations have been loosened. Ah. Stop talking about it. My little head hurts so much. 
It feels like it's about to explode. No, I can't do it anymore. Awo. Blood essence. Blood essence. Quickly give me blood essence. I'll give it to you. Wait up. Hey. Other stop it. Ayo woo. I'm full. A man who has been emptied out. Ayo woo. Thank you. Since you don't know who you are right now, how about I give you a name? Name? But I do have a name in the past, I just don't remember it now. A nickname. It's not a name, just a nickname that I can address you by. Well, that works. But what do you want to call me as? Since you've been howling Ao Wu, I'll call you. Ao Wu. Ao Wu? Ao Wu. I like Ao Wu. I like this name. I'm so happy. I'm too happy. So I'll let you take a look at all my treasures. Treasures. These are all my treasures, but some were placed here by others. Ah, uh, this. Slowed. Sound sword technique, purple rank top grave. You actually had this skill at hand? So what was the point of me getting through the training grounds then? You can't possibly have all of his skills, right? What are you trying to do? Ao Wu, where did you get all of these from? I guess I can only use sweet words to cheat my way through. It was placed here with me by others. Who are these other people? Uh, I forgot. Then, can you let me have a look at all of them? What? What did you just say? I said, Give me those jade slips, and I'll squeeze out all my blood essence for you no matter what. Blood essence? Okay, sure. Where are the jade slips then? What? What did you say? Why do you always speak so softly? This guy, she's trying to be selectively deaf, right? In the end, Lu Chaoga couldn't receive any jade scrolls from the deaf Ao Wu. Ao Wu has a large collection of jade slips. There's a high possibility that she has all the inheritance of the first generation sword sovereign. At the sword monument, there are a total of three skills. I already have two of them. The other one might just be with her. Furthermore, she had seen Emperor Qing when he was still alive. As well as his last disciple, Lu Li, if the Purple Moon worshipped by the Purple Moon Association is the Emperor Qing's heart, then there'd be a reason why she's in conflict with them. But that Lu Li, why is it that I've never heard of that name? Even in my previous life where I played this game, I've not come across any plot points related to him. Did something hide his identity? Right, there's still the gift that Sinyan left for me to open before I go to sleep. Let's not think about these anymore and go check out what it is. Jiang Sinyan's Bamboo House HM? Why are you here? Brother, I'm waiting for you. Brother, I've been waiting for you for a long time. Why are you waiting for me? If you're waiting for me, why don't you wait in my house? I want to see it. I just want to see what Sister Jiang left for you. Donley. Kids should sit out of adults' matters. You can take a look, but I have to make sure if it's something you can see first. Damn it. I'm no longer a child since a long time ago. I'm all grown up already. Whether you are grown up or not, you should know yourself best. Damn it. You shitty brother. Ed, brother's state, it's a bit off. His aura feels extra weak today, different from his usual self. Brother, are you okay? It's nothing. I only did an equivalent exchange with the ancestral spirit. Brother has sacrificed so much for us, but this is the first time I've seen him like this. Yet, I'm still thinking about whether or not there's something going on between brother and sister Jiang. The me who is like this, am I really worthy of my brother, who is the M.O. Sex Sect leader? Can I even be called M.O. Sex Elder? Clean and neat, just like her personality. That pendant on the table must be something she left behind for me, right? right? Warm to the touch, just like someone's body warmth. 
HM, there's a special array on it. Black JDE lock it warm, soft. Tough, ability, there's a great fire array engraved in it, able to block one blast from cultivators above the fifth rank, remarks, this item was worn often. If you take a sniff, you'll be able to smell the owner's body scent. It's another defensive item, similar to the one Aunt Ning gave me. Do I look like someone who's always getting beaten up easily? But, the system remark says that it has the owner's scent. Then, this is something that Sinyan has worn herself, right? Will there be? A fire array. Sister Jiang gave you this, but for what reason? It's just a jade. Why did she ask you to take it before you sleep? You don't even know that? This is because it's a ceremonious sense. The next time you give me any gifts, remember to create some ceremonious sense too. Don't always give it in such a boring way. Make it feel like I'm opening a bomb or something. Ceremonious sense. Ceremonious sense? To retrieve it before sleep and this safe word. Is this your way of telling me good night? Uh, I'll go down the mountain again tomorrow. There are only five more days until the new players descend from the closed beta testing. I have to make more preparations. Lou Donnelly's house. Using the lights to reflect it, does it look a little similar? It's not even a little close. The next day. Huff, huff, I've become an expert at practicing the technique now, to the point where I can bleed from all of my orifices. The time is near. I should prepare to get going. I'll bring along little Lee Z too. It's about time that she learns to get used to it. For a woman like Jiang Xinyan to say goodnight to me, that can only mean that our relationship has greatly progressed. After all, she's not a spoiled princess with all kinds of men to choose from. Since she has said goodnight now, what would the next step be? I guess she will say you're really amazing earlier on. Not going. Why not? I want to cultivate here. I refuse to go down the mountains. It's dangerous. I don't want to spend any time alone with brother. It sucks. It's not the time to play it safe. What kind of danger would there be on going down the mountains for a while? No means no. Forget it then. I'll go alone. I want to go. Xiao Qiu wants to go? Sure, then you can come with me. No. She can't go either. Why not? She's still young. Having some fun outside of the mountain is normal. Brother, how could you still ask me why? You're the one who misguided Xiao Qiu. Did I? Nope. That attitude of hers, it's clearly influenced by you. Xiao Qiu, you've promised me before, so you're not allowed to leave the mountains. Xiao Qiu understands. Xiao Qiu is your closed door disciple, so I'm not allowed to leave the mountains. The doors have been shut. There are no open doors for Xiao Qiu, but I can pick her up and bring her down the mountains with me. I've decided Xiao Qiu will come with me. Yay! Picked up. If you want to leave, then get out of here quickly. Xiao Qiu, listen up properly. When you're out of the mountains, you are the sect leader's disciple. Remember that. Now hurry and go. What's wrong with Domli? She wasn't like this in the past. Could it be that the love faded? To have someone to order around, he decided to bring along Luo Bing. Xiao Qiu, although I'm bringing you out for a breather, there are things that I need to tell you in advance. Master, go ahead. I'm listening. You're better off calling me sect leader. Oh, okay. This world is vast, and I hope that you can relax your minds a little and be open to accepting new things. There are all sorts of weird people out of the mountains. Some may stand in a row and jump to move forward. Some might roll on the ground. Don't discriminate against them. The bad habits of players from the 21st century, sometimes they start spamming the jump button while rushing ahead. There are still people doing the same in the 22nd century. Are there really such weird people? Yes, there are more than you think. Furthermore, we of the MO sect have great potential. 
We're like a deeply hidden dragon. If we were to roam freely, it would surely attract the admiration of many. If we were to run into bootlickers, I hope you can retain your original intentions and try to act a little colder. New players are like that. The colder you are, the more they want to lick up to you. After all, if you can so easily lick up to someone, that means they must be normal NPCs. Only the characters that refuse to let you kiss up to are likely to hold some kind of hidden plot. Sect leader, what is a bootlicker? The type of person who would listen and follow your every demand, doing their best to be nice to you so that you feel comfortable with them. They also have no pride whatsoever, holding firmly to the fact that even if you ignore them today, they will still return to look for you the next day regardless. Oh, so I'm the young lord's little bootlicker. Tower of Heavenly Secrets Tower Master, I found all of Luchauga's information. The man in this picture is deity-like, although he had only lived for about 20 years or so, he had truly been through many hard trials. Young and handsome, stuck in the beginning rank for many years without any improvement, parents had died due to a demon cultivator as well. Taking up the responsibility of a sect leader at such a young age, what a heavy burden. My heart aches for him. He was stuck in the beginner's rank for so long, but now he's showing tremendous results. Blessed by the heavens, awakened his sword intent, even ruining our tower master's plan, this man might have the potential similar to the sword sovereign. Ahem, Xian Ji. Yes, Tower Master. It'd be great to get to know him better. His information is here. Tower Master, please take a look. Xian Ji, help me carry out a task. Try getting in contact with Lu Chaoga. Regardless of what method you use, you must get closer to him. I need to know more about him. T to think I'd be given such an amazing job. You look really happy? I know you like to raise a fancy man. If you can succeed, I will naturally be happy about it. However, if you can't do what I ordered you to do well, then you should know the consequences. I, I understand. You may leave. Yes, Tower Master. Xian Ji may look like a dignified girl on the surface, but she's quite a wild girl within. A woman like her can undoubtedly seduce countless men. But if she were to overdo it and attract unwanted attention to the tower, it might be a big trouble for me. The journey of a thousand miles might be destroyed by just an ant's trail. I won't allow anyone to ruin the chess game planned out by the heaven. Yet, he was unaware that Lu Chaoga had already kicked out his two chess pieces despite not knowing his plans. One was the Demon Seed, and the other was Flying Bird City. Both had been dealt with cleanly. Outside of Flying Bird City, high-quality food ingredients like these only required the most basic cooking. Let me add some salt now. Wow. Young Lord, this really feels like we're a family of three out on a trip now. Xiao Qiu should be the youngest daughter of this family of three. How about you then? Young Lord, you can decide. Being obvious. If the young lord wants me to, I can address you as daddy. Daddy. If you keep going, I'll have to punish you. Hmm, so good. T then, please go ahead. Young lord can whip this servant. Hmm, so good, so so good. Aya, the flames aren't getting controlled properly. The fish soup won't be nice anymore. In front of me, everyone is a child if you're not 18 yet. Yes. System notification. There's 60 seconds left for 10,000 players from closed beta to enter. Countdown, start. They're finally here. The new players. Currently loading. Loading complete. Welcome to Tianxian World. Tianxian World. Start game. What's coming? As they flap around and rushing towards here and there while making weird screams, those 10,000 noobs are coming. And noobs? What's that? Can you eat them? Time and space has stopped.
Loading complete. Extremely strong player level 1, big headed bell level 1, supervising commander level 1, I'm not gay level 1. This is, the world's most fantasy like, the grandest, MMO world. Lin Huagan level 1, Tianxian world. Amazing. I can control it just like my real body. Count off. The other guilds have entered two. One. Two. Three. Four. What the heck, they're really hugging the tree. If it's so real, I wonder if I can take off my pants in this world. Brimming with curiosity. Yeah, what if we're brimming with curiosity too, how about we? What kind of people are these? Can't they act more decently? These bunch of fools, the first step in entering the game is to look for wild monsters. What indecent play are they having here? Lin Hua gone level 1, obtained a weapon, wooden stick. The most important thing is to level up first. After all, Vice Guild Master, while your skills are amazing, your looks are average and you have no speciality. I'll still give you one of the first batch slots since your family is pretty well known. Guild Master, don't disappoint me. I definitely can't disappoint the Guild Master since he's expecting so much of me. I, Lin Huagan, aims to be number one in this world. Monsters, here I come. Ha, huh, where are the monsters? Where the fuck are they? Why is this forest cleaner than my face? Is the start of this game that peaceful? Damn it. Why did I even pick up a wooden stick? It's kind of boring to be so peaceful though. Oh well, let's check out what the others are doing in the group chat. Why isn't anyone showing up? Aren't you guys bored too? 10 muscular chads in the beta testing 10, why isn't anyone showing up? Aren't you guys bored too? After a while, there's still no replies. Damn it, why aren't those stinky brats answering me? Red packet amount 3, currency amount 666 yuan, let me send some pocket money to get their attention then. Congrats, congrats, may you be prosperous. Another long while later, usually, they're super quick to snatch the red packet. Why is it so quiet today? Are they busy? Congrats, congrats, may you be prosperous. Ten muscular chads guild master snatched your red packet. There are all kinds of birds in the sky has snatched your red packet. Triple X snatched your red packet. Those guys finally snatched the red packets. He he, finally a reply. Vice guild master, what's your situation over there? Why do you have the time to send messages? Damn it, attacking me again. Watch how I beat you all up. Damn it. What's going on? Beat up? Who? The tree? It can't be. Vice Guild Master, thanks for your red packet. Damn it. This wild boar monster is cornering me. Ah, uh, it hurts. Could it be, there are monsters everywhere except here? Am I, Lin Hua gone, this unlucky? Oh right, the city. Now I know where the monsters are. Since there are no monsters outside the city, it means they must be inside the city. What would they be? Zombies? Ghouls? Thugs? I'm already killing right from the start. Truly, my start is different from the others. Flying Bird City they're coming. Die. Huh? Eh? None have red name bars? Huh? How is that player level 2 already? I'm not a prostitute level 2. Hey girly, how did you become level 2? Did you find any monsters? Stupid dog, there are some people giving out tasks out there. Go and get it yourself. Now stop fucking blocking my way. I'm fucking busy completing a task to level up. To think she made a snake-like face for herself. Thanks. Why does she have such a sharp tongue? I can easily tell that you're a loser from just one look. 
I can't afford to assist someone like you. Don't dare stand in my way again from now on. I only want to befriend tall, handsome, and rich men. Not a dirty dog like you. I may have much pocket money to spend, but I'm no idiot. Some tall, rich, handsome guy. Who would fancy you? Disgusting. How annoying. It smells good. Isn't this too realistic? Can I have a sesame bun? I haven't tried eating food and games yet. Ugh. If you want one, pay up first. Pay up? Huh? The person who gives out tasks. I finally found you. Do you need help? Did any monsters attack you? You came right on time, young one. Help me gather a basket of fruits and I will give you five copper coins as a reward. Gather fruits? So they were all doing this task? I'll accept this task. From now on, Len Huagan would spend his days farming, picking fruits. While others hunted monsters, he would climb trees. When others are killed by monsters, he's picking fruits, but did the Flying Bird City really not have any monsters? No, it did have originally. But a legend passed by, and they were all gone. Three days later, Dumpling Store, the flying birds from the 10,000 bird forest out there suddenly became so violent. They would chase you relentlessly to your death. It was a cultivator, the sect leader of M.O. sect, Lu Chauga, he saved us all. With ten sword slashes, he obliterated the flying birds, one slash took out thousands of them. M.O. sect sect leader Lu Chauga? Sounds like a big shot. Ridiculous. It was only three sword slashes. One slash took out 10,000 flying birds. One slash took out 10,000 flying birds. Three slashes? That's not it at all. I heard that he actually only swung his sword once. Once? My cousin said that he only swung his sword once that day and cleared out the entire sky. Not only did he save everyone in the city, but he also stole our hearts. For real? Absolutely. It definitely was one slash. We remembered it wrongly just now. He's an immortal who's out of this world. He wouldn't need a second slash to handle those mere flying birds. Such a godly slash that can obliterate the entire forest of monsters. This NPC is insane. Does anyone know how I can go meet this M.O. sect sec leader? As for the person whose reputation spreading among the noob players. Sect leader, why aren't you reeling it in yet? Seems like the young lord's mind is not on the fish, but in the mountain scenery. Speaking of the mountain scenery, it reminds me of my own mountains. I've been working hard on my night training. They seem a little bit bigger. I wonder if the young lord has noticed. Amazing, truly amazing. As an NPC, to think I can visit the player forums? As an NPC, if I could post something, wouldn't that be? You have no rights to post. I'm restricted? And it seems like it's permanent too? Oh well, if I can't post, at least I can roam and see who's talking badly about me. I'll kill them off several times. But that's not really the point of roaming the forum? It's been 20 years since I last saw pics with pantyhose, made outfits, and more. This is all there is? Those legs aren't good enough. It can't even be compared with Shaolizis. Boring. Let's see how the players at Flying Bird City are doing. Flying Bird City topic shocking. Tian Xian World is actually a farming simulator? Ridiculous. There are monsters everywhere, but why in Flying Bird City? The legend of the mysterious cultivator from Flying Bird City. His portrait I personally drawled, don't miss, with just one slash of his sword, he took down an entire forest of flying birds. Flying Bird City's fruit map, Flying Bird City scenery map. Interesting. A portrait? Let's see if it resembles me. HM? It does look handsome, but not so much like me. It's not even the slightest bit similar. Wow. So handsome. I'm saving it. I love it so much. 
I'm not expecting this Lu Chauvia NPC to be this handsome, but if even his back is half as handsome as this, I'm definitely giving my all to this game. Agreed. Not just half, even if it's only one third, I will clean myself up and try to enter MO sect as a disciple. HM? Why do you need to thoroughly clean ply yourself? Are you a piece of white paper waiting for the MO sect to taint you black? Now that you said it like that, I kind of reply want to do that. Please, dye me in black ink, draw on me with your soft brushes, ah. Alert. Don't act so indecently at the forum. Female fans are always the most passionate. His portrait I personally draw it, don't miss it, view 4221, comment 6944, like 4126, author ID, Lang Min, to think it's him. He was a well-known artist in my past life. Maybe I can promote him into my exclusive artist in the future. Then, it's time to show my face a little. Sect Leader Fish The fishes have been hooked. Outside Flying Bird City I've gotten so used to picking fruits that I don't even have any unnecessary movements anymore. My hands are familiar with it. It's not so bad like this actually. Away from the city's bustling, gaining only the tiniest experience and money, then eating a bowl of hot dumpling soup with a sesame bun. Exactly. But, do you think we have a chance of meeting that legendary NPC? M.O. Sex Sec Leader Lu Chauga? Yes, since there are so many legends about him in Flying Bird City. Doesn't seem possible. According to my experience, a character like him is often the leader of many NPCs. He only shows up to rile up the players. But I feel like I could run into him. Reason being? A woman's intuition. Can you see that wilted tree there? If we can meet him, I'll eat that entire tree. This is the game's typical plot, let me tell you. Look. A shooting star. That's not a shooting star, but a cultivator. What a beautiful girl. It's Sec Leader Lu. It's M.O. Sec Sec Leader Lu. I've seen him before. What? If it really is Sec Leader Lu, will you eat this wilted tree? This world is so realistic, it must be really realistic as well to eat a tree, huh? Look. He's landing here. Whoa, it's a leaf boat tool. God, he's so handsome. Truly divine. Isn't that the legendary flying tool? How much money do I have to spend to get it? I'll go top up right away. M.O. Sec Disciple Chio, Level 12, Note, Genius Young Girl, Outstanding. M.O. Sec Disciple Luo Bing, Level 17, Note, It seems like on some unnoticeable spot, there are added attributes. They really are M.O. Sec Disciples. Look at the system labels. Oh, it's true. Those two girls look so mysterious. No, take a look at that man's label. Sect leader of MO sect, Lu Chao GE level, unknown, note, unknown, question marks. Only characters who are higher 20 levels than us will have question marks. Which means, the MO sect sect leader should be at least over level 20, it can't be just 20 levels higher. After all, he's a sect leader. Such legendary master, I'm afraid, it's even possible that he's 70 or 80 levels higher than us. My MO sect disciples are all talented, it'd be such a waste to keep them within the MO sect with such limited resources. For their future, I have to debut as an idol too. No way. He's stepping on air? Is that really possible? I is he an immortal? He really is stepping in midair. Oh my god. Holy shit. This is insane. An immortal. He is definitely an immortal. Under my feet is a super thin water mirror conjured by my power of water. Of course you guys can't see it. This effect is exactly what I want. It's about time to descend as a divine immortal. Spiritual wind activated. Were you praying to me? Lang Man's drawing isn't even comparable to the real thing. 
an Eichmann. I've seen a true Eichmann. What Eichmann, this is a martial arts fantasy world, call him an immortal that walked out of a painting. Ah, his voice sounds so good. Holy shit, he really came to this new B city. Could it be that we have no monsters in this new B city, it's because there's a true surprise like this waiting for us. We may seem like the unlucky ones on the surface, but the true fortunate ones are us. A hidden Easter egg. We're in luck now. I must build a good relationship with this legendary character. Can I be the first lucky one? This tree was praying for help. I was able to be sensed through the peach blossom mark. Perhaps it has the potential to become a spiritual tree. This venerable one will give you a hand. Isn't that too epic? Look, quickly. That fruit is not ordinary. It's a spiritual fruit. Vermilion fruit, high grade, quality, spiritual fruit, oh my god. It really is. It can't be. Did he transform the tree? Is this the charm of a martial arts fantasy world? It's crazy. Are you thanking me? Then this venerable one will accept it. Master will like it for sure. Let's keep it for her. Were there any monsters around here lately? Thanks to sect leader Lu's help, Flying Bird City has become safe and peaceful. Thank you, sect leader Lu. There are already a few bootlickers who mixed in with the residents and started licking up. You can rise. Damn it, why? Why didn't I bow down earlier? Wouldn't that have meant he indirectly touched me? If he has any more orders after this, we'll surely carry them out. No matter in what way, I want to build some kind of relationship with him. Please look this way. If that's the case, that'd be great. Sect Leader Lu. Wait up, Sect Leader Lu. Sect Leader Lu. Don't leave. A bunch of idiots, as if they were chasing after a plane. In times like this. Of course you should post it on the forum to brag. Shocking. M.O. Sect Sect Leader, someone with bottomless strength. M.O. Sect Sect Leader single-handedly made flowers bloom. A wilted tree came back to life. I want this man. His back view is so beautiful that it's suffocating. That day, every little detail of Sect Leader Lu touched me. Tell me M.O. Sect's landmark, I definitely have to become a disciple there. Same here, it's not for his charm, but purely to learn cultivation. Fuck, I'm obsessed. Isn't he way too divine? I'm going to share this game as much as I can. This NPC is mine. My husband, Lu Chauga, isn't that handsome. He kicks his blanket away when he sleeps at night. Hurry up, start the open beta testing, I can't wait anymore. Can you sleep with the NPCs in this game? I'm purely asking out of curiosity. Lang Min, portrait please. A portrait please. Lang Min, Lord Lang Min, please post a new photo for us. Topic, Lang Min, sorry. Regarding MO sect sect lead. Lang Min, sorry. Regarding MO sect sect leader. Author ID, Lang Min, thank you everyone for your support. I've tried it multiple times before, but I was unsatisfied with each attempt. The ones who understand me should know that I have high expectations for myself. I am sorry to disappoint everyone's expectations. All I can say is underscore such a level of beauty, I can't draw it out. Gulp. Just as planned. The goal of showing up once has finally been achieved officially. Players tend to be very forgetful. If I hadn't made such advanced preparations and they learned about the Sword Sect, Chun Chiu Mountain, and the likes, M.O. Sect wouldn't have a future anymore. As to why I left right after showing myself for a bit, that is, of course, for the mysterious effect. Only when I show a bit and hide a bit, and be reachable yet seemingly unreachable too, can the perfection effect be maximized. The fish got hooked. 
Furthermore, as an NPC, I left a unique, hidden task for the players at Flying Bird City before I left. Searching for the Chosen Ones, System Notice, the sect leader of MO Sect, Lu Chao Ge, is still roaming around the 10,000 Bird Forest. If you happen to meet him by chance and receive his favor, there is a certain percentage chance of unlocking more hidden plots and acquiring more opportunities. Searching for the Chosen Ones, we won. We won big time. It wasn't a waste to be picking fruits all along. Oh. My goodness. Who would reject this chance to become a chosen one? This Lu Chao Ge, who is so handsome, can't be this world's main character, right? There are still 10 more minutes left to the Flying Bird City's fruit picking mission. Please finish it as soon as possible. Pick fruits? Who the fuck would pick fruits anymore? Let's try our luck. I want to be in the forefront. The chosen one must be me. They're here. But to be able to find me, it wouldn't be that easy. To be chosen by me, it will have to depend on your talent. I don't want talentless ones, noob ones, or stupid ones. I don't want any of them. What a thick mist. Is this the real test? The first one to find sect leader Lu will be me. Where would he be? This handsome older brother. A familiar person from my previous life. Why is she here too? Lin Ali level 3. Lin Ali, a high level player from a well-known big guild. At the same time, she's also a famous game streamer. She likes to wear fox ear accessories during live streams. A great sprout that can help increase MO6 reputation a lot. Thank you kind Sir Lu, who sent in 100 rockets. You're ranked number one on my stream now, thank you, I love you. Kind Sir Lu has sent in Super Rockets X100, this Lin Ali, I was even in the top one spot in her live stream in my previous life, but the problem is, I've already slept with her. It was strictly just a deal between us then, but who knew after that? Say, can I have a status with you? What kind of? Can I be your official girlfriend? We're purely just a business relationship. What exactly am I in your heart? You're not in there. This time, I shouldn't rope you in anymore. This mist's so weird, as if there are wall-like barriers. This chosen one's test sure is extraordinary. Lin Hua gone, you are the only hope left for our love-fighting guild. As long as you can enter MO Sect, our guild will be able to progress further within MO Sect from now on and become the number one guild. Guild Master, Guild Master has passed this huge responsibility onto me. I can't ever disappoint him. That's right, this guy is Lu Chaoga's previous life's enemy guild's vice guild master. There seemed to be someone in front. I see him. But this son of a rich family didn't know, and the love fighting guild filled with rich people, all except for him, are just show off artists. The vice guild master, huh, an old rival in my previous life. Although I don't like it, having my old rival as my lackey isn't a bad thing. Spiritual wind, activated, from here on out, as long as there's a bowl of rice for this venerable one to eat, there will be a bowl for you to wash. This is like the legendary fishing alone in the cold river snow. So this is what a divine person looks like. Fish. What a huge fish. We have food for dinner now. You have gotten through this venerable one's mist spell array. This young master has conquered the close beta testing. I wait at the side. It seems like he's not choosing just me alone. But still... I'm the first one. He he. That chubby girl can't possibly be M.O. Sex Sect Leader's disciple, right? Then wouldn't I need to call that little sweetie as my senior sister afterwards? That won't do. If I were to call her senior sister, at least I'd be willing. Ah. So beautiful. Completely different from lowly girls out there. That guy seems to want to get on Luo Bing's good side. Lin Hua Gan's favorability, 
can be adjusted on your own. Huh, this favorability, I can even adjust it manually? If that's the case, then the reason why I didn't react at all to Lin Ali's beauty, which was considered the top of my standards in my previous life, is because my favorability for her is at zero? If that's true, then this favorability system is very amazing. Then let's use him as a lab rat. Still in a daze for Luo Bing. Lin Huagan's favorability, minus five, can be adjusted on your own. Lu Gauga's favorability for you, minus five. What is happening? I was clearly the first one, yet why did my favorability fall? I don't understand. How I see him hasn't changed. Could it be that it's not low enough? Let's try again. Lu Chaoga's favorability towards you minus 5. Lu Chaoga's current favorability you minus 10. Fuck. Fuck. Why is it still dropping? If it continues to decrease, he won't just come over to cut me down, right? I see. So the favorability won't affect my emotions. Lu Chaoga's view of Lin Hua gone now, but it influences the appearance of the player in my eyes. For example, he's really ugly to me right now. It must have been my earlier standing pose that was wrong. I have to stand up straight. It seems this favorability function can bring me something unique. Since I'm hard to predict, they will become nervous and wary. This isn't a bad thing anyway. Lu Chaoga's favorability towards you plus 5, Lu Chaoga's current favorability minus 5, it increased back. I was right. It's because I didn't stand up straight and properly earlier. I have to work harder. MOBU Shio level 2, I. Hurry up and stand properly over here. Ah. Uh, I see, so he's not only searching for one person. Did you grow cartwheels on your feet? How did you get here so fast? Stand properly, don't get in trouble. MOBU Shio, the second person I've chosen. The community has called him the insulting conductor. I told you to look out, not to find a good spot to dig a grave for yourself. You still dare to wear armor for yourself? I don't think there's any need for that, just wear your funeral clothes instead. If you're lacking fatherly love, just tell me. There's no need to bow down to the enemy as if they're your dad instead. I asked you to bait a monster over, yet you baited nothing? This is a fantasy martial art world, do you want to die? Take off your shoes. Don't you even add agility? Why are you so damn slow? After all, his commanding skills are in the top three in the entire Tianxian world. Now, it should be time for all of them to gather up. There's a path. A path showed up. L, is this the guidance for the chosen ones? After a short while, all of the people chosen by Lu Chaoga arrived one by one, but he's still missing one person to achieve his goal. 27. 28. 29. I want to pick 30 people out of 1,000 players in the close beta testing stage. Why is it so difficult? Huh, why can't I pass by here? It's like there's a barrier here. Huh? There's another one who managed to get here without my help? It's her. It seems like that 3.141-5926 luck of mine really is weird. Since it's destined, I should let her come over then. The barrier vanished. I found him. Hurry over here, pretty lady. We're about to become that divine person's disciples. We managed to become a chosen one disciple during the closed beta testing stage. It feels great. Let's go. You've all made it through the mist spell array that this venerable one has set. That means you withstood the test. Very well. It's here, it's here. To become actual chosen one disciples. It's the start of our great path. We're prepared. Let us set off. From now on, all of you will be my MO6 errand running disciples. What? Errand running disciples? That can't be. Did I really hear it correctly? Do you want to join MO sect? Status, errand running disciple. Yes slash no. Errand running disciples? 
that's the most bottom level. If it gets any lower, then it will be disciples who clean the shit up. Should we think ST about it? Once we've confirmed it, then our account may be permanently linked and can't be changed. The scariest part is that in this Tianqian world game, each person can only register for one verified account. I can't stand this. What if we met a better sect in the future? Is there anything left to consider? Let's take the gamble. A bicycle might turn into a motorcycle. Yes. Errand running disciple, Lin Hua Gong Level 1. This disciple greets the sect leader. This brat knows how to do things. I'll give him some privileges then. Lu Chaoga's favorability towards you plus 10. My god. I really didn't make the wrong decision. You people can keep on hesitating. I'm going to climb my way up alone. Young Lord seems really keen on accepting all of them as errand running disciples. I should do something for him. In our sect, even though you're an errand running disciple, you're still considered MO sex disciple, which means you'd be my junior brother. Idiots. Now I'm the junior brother of this extremely beautiful lady. Wah. Wah. You should work hard. Even our oldest senior brother started as an errand running disciple when he first joined. That means even an errand running disciple has a chance of becoming an official disciple? It sounds really possible. We may start out low and it may be a challenge, but there's a chance. Let's gamble. When to take the risk if not now? If you're not willing to take the risk, then go back farming. This disciple greets the sect leader. It seems the time is ripe. Now, it's time for them to accept the reality. Look at the character panel at the bottom. We've joined the MO sect. Sect, MO sect 9th rank sect, errand running disciple, 9th rank. Is that the highest or the lowest? 9th rank is the lowest. I've carefully read the guide before, the lowest? As the one chosen by the heavens, a sword cultivator who's rumored to have slayed the entire forest of flying birds, he's only the sect leader of a ninth rank sect? Did we fucking get scammed? This doesn't sound like a good start. But his back view is really handsome, ugh. You guys will understand in the near future, then, fill their minds with fantasies. This is your good fortunes. He turned around. This is the legendary M.O. Sex Sect leader's real appearance. It can't be. It can't be. Will this be groundbreaking news that'd rile up Tian Xian world? I can't. Look up. Such overwhelming pressure. No matter what happens, I must take a look at him today. I must. Warning. You are facing an innate supernatural O power, sword heart. Danger level, fatal. Do you want to give up on your life to look at him directly? If I start back again, I might not be able to enter M.O. Sect. What should I do? But if I had one look and recorded it as a video, I could become viral. Even if I die, I have to take a look today. He left? You're still the same. Is he talking about me? Did you guys see that warning? I did, to think we'd die if we take a look. Too scary, it's my first time receiving such a warning. It's even a red color. The danger level is fatal. What warning? What are you guys talking about? You didn't see it? I did. I saw it. Sect leader Lu's face. You saw his face directly? Without any warning notifications? This, what exactly is going on? Seeing all their expressions, it seems like I'm the only one who saw the sect leader's face. Doesn't that mean I'm the only one favored by the sect leader? Hmm, and here I thought everyone saw it too. You guys should have gained the sect leader's favorability as well, right? Why you gained that too? I feel like you're lying somehow. Huh? It can't be that I'm the only one who received five points for sect leader's favorability? Damn it. Only that guy, we're all zero. Also, there's something I forgot to tell you guys. I've recorded the sect leader's looks. You recorded it? Great job. 
I only saw him for a split second, but I'm willing to bet my entire life. We definitely got the best start in the Tianxian world. Definitely. I'm going to create a group after this. The sect leader's video will be shared within the group. Who wants to join? Me. 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 Even as an errand running disciple, I, Lin Hua Gan, will still be the best among all errand running disciples. Who creates the group will naturally be the group leader. So doesn't this mean I've secured my position? Pale yellow group, notifications, Lin Hua Gan, hello everyone, I am the group leader. Here is the sect leader's video. To think there's an unparalleled man in this world? Huh? There's something there. It's a jade slip. That's a cultivation technique. Cultivation, a common beginner's training technique used in Tianxian world. Created by the Emperor Qing and is the foundation of millions of techniques. Learnable. Quickly learn it. It's ridiculous if we don't learn it. We must. It's the first step of immoral cultivation. It's great being an errand running disciple. I've posted it. Only one copy. There are no other people who have a video of sect leader Lu's looks. Sect leader, this disciple will greatly increase your reputation. He he. It's been 13 minutes since I've intentionally let that brat take a video of my looks. He just posted it now. How slow. Also, this title. Is he asking for a beating? Shocking. This is what Lu Chowda looks like. Underaged girls should only view this under their parents' company. Isn't this too much? It's a whole miracle, right? Even the mother goddess isn't this gorgeous. He's so handsome, I'm crying. Crying? Where? Did you cry a river? I'm sorry, Triple X. I've cheated on you mentally. To think I'm such a lustful woman. Where's the need to stand boy groups anymore? They can't even compare. Quantity isn't everything. Quality is the best. This can't be. Is the Tianxian world game so amazing? Can I send real money to an NPC? Right. Support the addition of that function. Can we start a virtual boyfriend function too? I'm willing to throw in any amount of money. I really want to have an Oreo-like relationship with him. Twist it around, lick it a little, then submerge it. Who would have thought that a short two-second video could reach even non-fans? HM? Interesting. Poster, M.O. Sec Lin Hua Gan, reshares, M.O. Sec Lin Ali, M.O. Sec M.O. Bu Xiao, M.O. Sec Supervising Guard, M.O. Sec. Isn't this Lin Hua Gan, the Vice Guild Master of the Love Fighting Guild? Doesn't this mean the guild itself will be entering M.O. Sect as a whole? Look, even one of the top 10 live streamers, Lin Ali, has joined. She's my longtime crush. Stop dreaming. She might already have a sugar daddy supporting her. Sugar daddy my ass. Ali is the purest. No need to look at these meaningless praises anymore. But this whole incident did turn out to be successful. However, I intentionally went to check on something earlier. I could switch the players to the enemy side and the system didn't warn me about anything. Which means, I can easily kill off any players. I wonder how this world will turn out to be after these players have joined. Why are there so many weird people in this place? How handsome. I really want to give birth to his children. Oh, young lord, I'm dead with a gaze from him. Wow. I love him. Are these people crazy? What's going on here? It's because of M.O. Sex Sect leader, Lord Lu Chauga. They've all been won over by his dashing figure. After all, Lord Lu Chauga is at Heaven's Chose One. Heaven's Chosen One? No wonder he has such incredible looks. I see. No. I have a mission at hand. The Tower Master has said that he is the one carrying out Heaven's orders. 
How come a heaven's chosen one appeared out of nowhere? I have to inform the tower master right away. Heaven's secret tower. How dare he? The title of the chosen one shouldn't be given to someone like you. Even if such a thing exists, it should be me instead. Wait, the sight that I saw back then. Heaven's chosen one, heaven's chosen one? I'm the one carrying out the heaven's orders, implementing justice, but if that kid could ruin my chess pieces, the only possibility for someone who is able to ruin my chess pieces. He's someone who can jump out of the chessboard, he must be another carrier of heaven? Who could go against the heavens? Shin Ji, I want you to get near him, understand him, grow closer to him, at all costs. I must know clearly who exactly you are. Your massages are still so comfortable. So good. Yum, yum. It's great that the young lord likes it. If I could, I am willing to massage the young lord's shoulders forever. I learned it in the past. Massaging the shoulders is only the start. Then, use your fingers to slowly slide down and... I won't mention it since no one wants to hear it. This land is divided into four territories, with four of the biggest sects distributed among each territory coincidentally. This is why each territory is suitable for a beginner's village. Furthermore, Qingzhou have three beginner's villages. Flying Bird City is one of them. There isn't enough time to rush over to the other two villages now. But I can still try to go to one. I guess I can only head over there. Cat City, one of Qingzhou's three beginner's villages. This city was protected by the great cat demon in the past. So the people lived in peace with the cats. It's a paradise for cat lovers. Ah. Ah. However, the cats here refuse to have their tails touched. They'll definitely be angered if you touch it. The consequences are, your face will come into close contact with their claws. But as to why I chose this cat city, it isn't because I love cats. But because there's a boss there. And it can trigger the main plot of Ching Zhou. Xiao Qiu, do you want to try getting some real hands-on fighting? With you, sect leader? No, a monster. I can kill monsters too? Cat City outskirts, he he he, if I could smell his scent, how great would that be? Hunting down skeletons mission will be a invalid soon. Please complete it as soon as possible. On Ho. I replayed it 200 times in one go. I almost forgot I still have a mission. Skeleton monsters in the wild outskirts, here I come. Sun Tu Tu, the monsters in the wild outskirts of Cat City aren't cats, but skeletons. Cat City wild outskirts. What are you guys doing here if you're not going to kill monsters? Lord Monk, come over here quick. There's something great happening today. I'm not a monk. I'm a bald lady. What's going on? Why are those skeletons not attacking people, but instead partying? I haven't been to the nightclub in so long. Lord Monk, can I invite you to party together? Who would want to dance with this group of skeletons? Would you like to dance too? Just follow the music. Follow the dance steps. These people are hopeless. Huh? The ground is shaking. What's going on? Something's coming out. Is it a boss? This can't be. It really seems like it. Stop standing there in a daze. Do you want to wait till the boss finishes transforming? Oh right, I almost forgot. Let's go. Kill it before it fully emerges. At the very least, we have to clear off the other monsters around it or else it'll be hard to deal with later. Hurry. I'm heading right in first. Levels 5, Jiangshu, Grade, Boss. Level 5, Jiangshu, Grade, Boss. Danger level, Fatal. This is, look at the system warning. It's a boss. A level 5 boss. Boss monsters are much stronger and harder to kill. Oh shit, it's out. Jiangshu, it looks quite handsome. 
What's the use of that? If we die, we'll have to start over again. Stop rambling on and on. Let's cut it down first. So strong. This is level 5? What's that? What just fell? I can't see clearly, but it looks small. How terrifying. There can't be two bosses, right? Hee <laughs> hee. Loli. It's a loli. Oh my god, so cute. Oh god, if I do have such a cute daughter, even if it's someone else's, I'd still be happy to raise her. Wake up, you don't have the right to do so. I've seen that child on the forum. Xiao Chiyo. She's called Xiao Chiyo. M.O. Sex Disciple. Young Lord, can Junior Sister really handle it? She's only in sixth heavenly layer of first rank. Relax. Xiao Chiyo is much stronger than you think. Xiao Chiyo's talent is immense, but she requires hands on experience. Furthermore, her luck is at nine. Maybe she will bring me more surprises if she's the one to deal with this monster. Humph. Ah. Crap. All his stats are still rising. Will this lowly be in trouble? That shithead, come at me instead. Humph. She leveled up too. The scariest part is the condescending look on a lowly. When I join MO sect, I want to be like that too. Xiao Chiyo, you have to master this technique well. It's passed down by our sect leader, called Autumn Cicada. Look. What's that? Cicadas? So pretty. No, that's not cicadas. It's a sword aura. Heh, that's all there is to it. This lowly is insane. How smug. At such a young age, not learning how to be a good kid or your studies, but learning how to be so smug. What's wrong with being smug? Is that illegal? Which law says that's not okay? I love her. This lowly is amazing. Huh? What's this? It's a little cold. A luck of sure is different. When players brought down that boss in my previous life, there weren't any items dropped. That thing is the trigger for Tian Xian World's main plot. Have you had your fun? As expected, Lu Chaoga is here. Killing a boss is just fun to him? W what's going on? Xiao Qiu had enough fun. Come back then. How cool. Is that one of his divine tricks? Too cool. Let's go. Sect leader, I found this on that monster's corpse. Special item, Soul Jade Shard. Once you have collected three, you will receive a small amount of hidden info. It's indeed a Soul Jade Shard. But before I can collect all three, there's nothing much to do with it. You have discovered a crucial item. Do you want to start Ching Zhou's main plot mission? Yes slash no. I can really start it early. Yes. Ching Zhou's main plot mission has started. World mission, Sword of Hades. Current progress, 6.7%. The main plot hasn't even started officially. How come there's already 6.7% progress? This doesn't seem right. The four main plots in the Tian Xian world differ from one another, but ultimately they end up merging as one, plus. Ching Zhou's main plot progress was the lowest among the four back then. Ching Zhou's main plot completion progress, 78.6%. This doesn't make sense. A big territory with the lowest completion progress in the past already has 6.7% progress even before the open beta test? This is illogical. Wait. Ching Zhou's biggest and only difference from my previous life is the addition of me. Then that makes all the sense. 
With someone like me who can carry the game, fellow Ching Jiu colleagues, you are truly lucky. In my previous life, although I was Chen Chiu Mountain's disciple in Beizhou, but I wasn't completely clueless about Ching Jiu's main plot. Sword of Hades isn't a sword, but a group of humans. These people should have died, but they were revived. They're like the swords in the hand of Hades, and Hades will use them to massacre the world. Then, will Hei Ting, who was named the Seed of Demon, also be one of the Sword of Hades? The Sword of Hades refers to those who died but were revived. Hei Ting is still well alive, and there's hardly any aura of death around him. Furthermore, who knows what kind of person that old man who read his fortune? Maybe he's just a scammer. But if Hei Ting really is one of the Sword of Hades, what should I do? Only the dead who were revived were one of them, so he would have to die once. But he is this venerable one's disciple. I will protect them myself. I'd like to see who dares to kill him or even attempt to kill him. Last day of closed beta test, all my fellow junior sisters and brothers will say goodbye here, but let's meet again during the open beta test. Yeah. To be honest, I don't feel satisfied at all that I couldn't even meet Lu Chaogo once before the closed beta ended. Hey! Our well-known and popular live streamer, Ali, did you fall in love? If this were to get out, how many of your male viewers' hearts would shatter? That's right. I did fall for him. But what does that have to do with you guys? Lu Chaoga, even if you're not real, I still want to have a taste of you. Closed beta has ended. All players will be forced log out. Interesting, interesting. The entire forum is talking about Xiao Qiu. There are even sticker packs of Xiao Qiu. Sect leader, what are stickers? They're things that people want to use right after seeing it. Is it like that wooden sword of mine? Fuck. Who is it? ECT leader, please fall in love with me. 36 nights with Lu Chaoga, who dared to write and post BL fanfics about me. Don't let me run into you here. Bastard. Young lord, someone's at the entrance. HM? Waiting three long days was worth it. There really is such a handsome existence in this world. Xian Ji, one of the twelve tower leaders of the Heavenly Secret Tower. She's the 103rd most loved female NPC in the player's rankings. The reason being, she's very sensual. Even among the players, she was given the unique nickname of Lady Who Consumes. In Tian Xian World's Intimate Exchanges, she's definitely ranked at the top. Sect Leader Lu, Xian Ji has been waiting for you here for a long time. This person may not be that strong, because Heavenly Secret Tower isn't a cultivation sect, but an information organization. This woman has a way with her lips. With a few tricks, she can be threatening too. One of the Twelve Tower leaders of the Heavenly Secret Tower, what's your reason for visiting here? So handsome, if I could live with him forever, how great would that be? No, I have serious business to do this time. Under our tower head's orders, I've come to befriend the sect leader of M.O. Sect. And we're offering a heavenly secrets jade to you. As long as we manage to form a relationship, then my charms will definitely work. That jade is equivalent to a VIP card. With it, I can acquire any information from the heavenly secret tower. Indeed, it's quite a useful item. I appreciate the thought. Ah. Uh, if there's nothing else, feel free to be on your way. Sect Leader Lu, I came with the sincerity of the Heavenly Secret Tower. Is this how you're going to act? Sincerity? That's too insignificant for sincerity. Are you looking down at us? Crazy. He's looking down at us, the Heavenly Secret Tower. The information from Heavenly Secret Tower, I can easily gather on the forums. With a player like Lin Hua gone, he'd willingly help me gather information without me asking. What's the need for Heavenly Secret Tower? Therefore, you guys have no rights to be involved with us, M.O. Sect. It's not worth investing in this woman Xian Ji either. Why is this guy so fearless? 
Isn't he from one of the lower hundred sects, at the bottom of all? How dare he act this way? Could it be, this guy has a strong supporter from within the sword sect? Sect leader Lu, aren't you looking down at our heavenly secret tower too much? What we hold is not just mere information. If that's the case, then it'll only be beneficial to us if I manage to get a hold of him. Really? Then you seem to be looking down at our MO sect a little too much too. The Heavenly Secret Tower is well known for having a great influence in the entire world. But perhaps our MO sect is so insignificant that you guys missed out on us. That's all. Tower Lord Xian Ji, please return. Are all our lackeys that useless? Why do we know so little about MO sect? I must find out everything about MO sect right away. MO sect, Lu Chaoga, I'll be back. Sect leader, that heavenly secret tower, are they that amazing? SOSO. In the 300 sects under sword sect, the few sects at the top of the first 100 ones are all third rank sections as for the heavenly secret tower, their equivalent to them. Third rank sect, huh. Our MO sect is ninth rank. Nine is bigger than three. Then doesn't that mean MO sect is greater than them? Ha ha ha. To think it's a weaker sect than ours. This brat has really learned from me. Young Lord, that senior Xian Ji earlier on. I don't think she's that simple. Which aspect are you referring to? Regarding the way she lives. How did you draw your conclusions from that? Woman's intuition. Your intuition sure is accurate, but you're still a young girl. Go on. Go report to your master that we've returned. Young lord, just now. Poke me. When the young lord bought me with 10,000 tails when I was 11 years old, I'd already turned into a woman. I'm the young lord's woman. Why is the second senior sister so happy? Did she smell some kind of delicious scent? Brother, you're back. Brother, was it a difficult trip this time? Did you wait a long time for me? Not too long. From the moment you entered the gates, I already felt your presence. No matter what happened or what kind of person appeared, my brother will still come see me first thing when he returns. No one can replace my position in my brother's heart. Not even Sister Jiang. Not bad, not bad, you've broken through. Sect leader said that this is considered normal for someone like me. Humph. Look at how proud you've become. Brother, why not share with me what happened these past few days? Oh, right. This time, something big did happen. This venerable one has accepted 30 new errand running disciples for our MO sect from the trip down the mountains. What? 30? Where do we find enough resources to provide for so many people? Brother, are you serious? Of course. This time, the 30 errand running disciples will not require any resources for cultivation or food. They're simply tools. Tools? Disciples who won't need meals or resources, such people exist. There is, and not only that, there'll also be more in the future. Noob players will not only survive without resources, but they will also complete their tasks with enthusiasm. Who knows, maybe they can even earn resources for our sect. Because they don't really care about money, they just want to have fun playing the game. But 30 disciples, even just teaching them, will take a lot of effort. There's no need to do so. Just let them replenish the water supply, pick fruits, and wash the dishes. That will be enough for their cultivation. Even washing dishes? Ching Long River, Heavenly Secret Tower Branch. Everyone in the tower, come on out. El Lord Xian Ji, what is it that you've called upon us for? All of you, go and investigate M.O. Sect. You can't miss even a single detail, present them all to me. If there's even a tiny bit of carelessness, you will be punished severely. Understood. I'd like to see who exactly is supporting M.O. Sect. Lord Xian Ji, here is the information about M.O. Sect. All of them are here. Our information regarding M.O. Sect in the tower is truly not a lot. Sword Sect's direct disciple, Chang Xiao, once visited M.O. Sect. 
That guy is at the bottom of all direct disciples at Sword Sect. There's nothing to take note of. The daughter of the Sword Sovereign, Li Nanwei, stayed at M.O. Sect for a few days. Lu Chaoga have connections with her. Could it be? Lady Wei. Sir Lu. Ah. If that's really the case, then Lu Chaoga would be the Sword Sovereign's son-in-law. Then I wouldn't have a chance against her, would I? If I were to touch him, what Li Nan Wei has rode before, even the tower can't protect me. Why is Lord Xian Ji in such sorrow all of a sudden? Lord Xian Ji, what has angered you this way? None of your business, scram. Why yes? This lowly one will scram right away. However, with the Sword Sovereign's daughter's position, she wouldn't so easily start anything serious with Lu Chao Ji. Could it just be friendship? If so, I might still have a chance. How could this be? What's going on? That guy has a relationship with Chun Chiu Mountain's Jiang Xingyan too? Why? Why did someone of such high caliber get blessed by the 10,000 year peach tree along with Lu Chaoga? Could it be she has already become a Taoist couple with Lu Chaoga? I refuse to believe it. I won't. Is there anything else I missed out on? This. Sword sect elder Ning Ying appears to have a close relationship with Lu Charge's deceased mother. I should have known. That flying tool of his, it's a signature tool of only craft master of sword sect, Ning Ying. The sword sect's elder Ning Ying is a sixth rank great cultivator. Even throughout the entire Tianqian, she is regarded one of the strongest in the previous generation. And as a great cultivator, she is well known for her skill as a weapon refiner. She is one of the rare weapon refiners in the entire Tianqian world. Weapon refiner Master Ning, most of the great swords and weapons from the sword sect came out of her hands. And, according to Heavenly Secret Tower's information, this weapon refiner master doesn't have a single disciple. And if such a person sees Lu Chaoga as her nephew, then this little M.O. sect is involved with too many great people. Ah, why is this Lu Chaoga so hard to handle? M.O. Sect Dan Qing Mountain, just as Xian Ji is frustrated by the situation, Lu Chaoga was currently busy. Are you ready? Brother, I'm ready. We can start now. Okay, let's start then. Forbidden Array Activated Little Lizzie's talent in spell arrays is indeed excellent. I only gave her the formation of this Forbidden Array two days ago, but she already managed to construct it. My sister is amazing. However, as to why we need to put out this array, it's mainly to isolate the players. After all, M.O. Sect's current atmosphere is not like a sect, but more like a family. In the future, there will surely be a huge number of external disciples coming into M.O. Sect. Our family will then become affected. To prevent that from happening, I have to isolate the tools out of M.O. Sect. Doing so also gives another benefit. I wonder when I can become an inner disciple of M.O. Sect. I'm looking forward to it. It will lead those new players to think that our M.O. Sect is so much higher up and amazing. Huff, huff, huff. This forbidden array can keep our sect safer, no matter what I have to finish it well. We're done for today. Let's go back and rest. It's all right, brother. I want to hurry up and finish this array. Such a big array can't be completed in just two or three days. Overworking and forcing yourself might harm your spiritual consciousness. Think about it. If your spiritual consciousness is harmed, then enemies were to invade at that time and you couldn't notice it. Rest. I'll start resting right away. Go take a break under that tree over there. I'll reward you with a bowl of rock sugar pear that I made myself. Trying to appease me with just a bowl of dessert. My brother has gotten more and more stingy lately. So you're saying you don't want it? Only an idiot wouldn't want it. But this isn't enough. I want more from you, brother. Massage my shoulders and legs for me, brother. Then I won't feel tired at all today. This pair of legs, if it was any other man massaging them, then it would be the greatest reward for him instead. 
I'll pet you instead. Hmm, Dawn Lee is already a grown woman now. Brother. H.M.? I formed my sword intent. Really? That's a good thing. I'll cook up something special tonight then. Yay! Dawn Lee may have formed her sword intent a long time ago, or she may have only realized it was stable today. Either way, this is great event not only for the sword cultivation world, but also for her brother, me. No matter what happens, Dawn Lee will still be Dawn Lee, and I will still be me. She'll forever remain as the little girl who looks forward to my cooking, my younger sister. And the final dish. Spicy clay pot fish. The dishes made by sect leader are so amazing. I want to finish three bowls tonight. Xiao Chiu, that's already your fourth bowl though. Ha ha ha. Ah? I've already eaten that much? Ha ha ha. Regarding Ching Zhou's main plot story, I should find a chance to talk to Hei Ting about it. After dinner, senior brother, I'll leave those to you. Mo Dongfang, you'll be washing the dishes today. Hey Ting, come with me. Even the great sage Heaven's Equal started with small chores like washing dishes. I will take out something in a while, use your spiritual consciousness and feel it carefully. MHM What's wrong? This thing's reaction speed isn't normal. Will you use the Soul Jade Shard on Hei Ting? You and use him as the Soul Jade's container. He has the ability to purify it. Huh? The Soul Jade is a crucial tool related to the Sword of Hades. Without it, the main plot in Qing Zhou won't be activated. While Hei Ting has the ability to purify the Soul Jade, perhaps the development of Qing Zhou's main plot is indeed related to Hei Ting. Who would have thought? The quiet, Meek boy I picked up from the mountains without much thought ended up being one of the crucial key to unlocking Ching Zhou's main plot. It seems like my luck isn't so bad. Close your eyes, focus your mind. According to the system's alert notification, this item won't cause any harm to Hei Ting. It might even benefit him. Let's try. MHM if this shitty system lied to me and ended up harming my only disciple, then I won't mind ruining it as well. Isn't that the shard from the juncture? Why would the young lord use it on seeing your brother? Hey Ting, what secrets are within you? He broke through, but it's slightly different in his case. Usually when one breaks through, they make use of the heaven and earth's spiritual energy and guide it into their body. But for Hei Ting, it comes from within. His body has created a kind of energy inside. Hei Ting broke through three stages in one go. Rank 1, 7th Heavenly Layer. Such a small shard manages to trigger such an amazing effect? Then, if I managed to get a whole soul jade for him, what would happen? Won't he rise up more quickly? Within the Ching Zhou Sword of Hades' main plot, getting my hands on a few whole soul jade pearls for Hei Ting isn't a difficult thing to do for this venerable one. Congratulations on acquiring 20,000 experience points from the Master Disciple system. Great, one broken shard can be used in two different ways. I definitely won big time. But something like Soul Jade, it's hard to tell if it's really a good or bad item. If he's able to purify it completely without getting injured, that'd be really great. But I'm afraid it won't be that easy. Senior brother broke through three stages. What did sect leader do? Wah. Senior brother is amazing. Hei Ting isn't big brother. This kind of breakthrough speed, something's wrong. Furthermore, Hei Ting's presence seemed to have gotten even lower now. If he had cultivated the art of concealment, then he would be like a spirit without a single trace. Did you feel that? Yes. In that split second earlier, I felt like Hei Ting's shadow came to life. 
Hei Ting had a pure personality, but his shadow showed a split second of undoubtedly evilness. We can only come to a conclusion when he wakes up. After a few moments. How is it? Master, this disciple doesn't feel anything. It's as if I just had a long dream. I dreamed of a sea that was frozen, and I was lying on top of the surface. The seawater is black in color, flowing endlessly under the thick ice. There seems to be something at the seabed. They're talking to me and continuously repeating the same thing. What did they say? They said, Wake up! Wake up! Wake up? Then, is there anything wrong with your body? But what lies under the thick black ice, it doesn't. Seems to be scary. On the contrary, they gave me a strong sense of security, as if I was by master's side. It's a relief that you're all right then. I suppose the secret that lies in Hei Ting's body will have to be investigated in the future. Hei Ting aside, Xiao Qiu's talent is tremendous and her luck is nine. Luo Bing's talent isn't far off either. She might trigger a hidden plot as well. Even though M.O. Dong Fong appears average, that heart of his isn't bad either. These brats that my sister and I picked up all these years will all be formidable people in the future. It's getting late. Go and get some rest. Brother, do you know what day it is in a few days? Huh? When women ask questions like this, if you can't answer them, then it would only mean death. My sister's birthday? My birthday. Valentine's Day? Whose birthday? Children's Day? Brother, I don't know what you're thinking about all day long. How could you forget such an important day? Please give me a hint. As M.O. Sect's only elder, I hereby solemnly inform the sect leader. In a few days, it's the ranking day for the 300 sects under the sword sect. Wow, so it's that day. That expression of yours, are you that confident in the rankings this time, brother? Could it be that Elder Dong Li, you are not? He he he, M.O. Sect will thrive in the rankings this time. As M.O. Sect's ancestral teaching, do not be ashamed of your sword. If we can gain back honor for the M.O. Sect, will you be willing to show your true skills, little Lizzie? Of course. Great. To rebuild M.O. Sect's glory and honor, we shall give it our all. M.O. Sect was once ranked 45th out of the middle hundred sections. It was only due to inevitable circumstances that they had fallen to this level today. Brother, what rank are you aiming for? Speaking of which, the Gung Jin Sect and Chiu Shui Sect Sect leader had once come over. In their words, they are hinting that the M.O. Sect could at least reach the top 50 of the lower hundred sects. Really? Can't really blame them. The skies in this world are way too low. The second day, morning. I have to hurry. I need to finish the task that sect leader has given to me. I finally reached. Gambling house. I'm only here under sect leader's orders. I'm not breaking any rules. We're starting. A number of cultivators are challenging MO sect sect leader Lu. It's 1 to 10 if you bet on sect leader lose win. It's 1 to 2 if you bet on the challenger's win. Place your bets. Why is the ratio so big for sect leader's win and so little for the challenger's? Little brother, do you not get it? There will be several people to wear him down. As long as one challenger can win against sect leader Lu, then it's our win. In this situation, sect leader Lu might be able to win against two or three of them, but what if there are more people? Sect leader Lu is also just a human who can also get tired. So I'll bet on the challengers. Me too. Me too. I'll bet on them too. I'll bet on M.O. Sect Sect leader Lu. The 300 sects under the sword sect are separated into upper, middle, and lower. Every rank has 100 sections this has been mentioned before, but we'll talk about it again to fill in the blanks. Sword sect. Upper hundred sex, middle hundred sex, lower hundred sex, but does anyone know how they were categorized like that? 
and every three years, there will be a selection. Sword sect will assess every sect based on their reputation, sect leaders' strength, their structure, and more. There are times when they need to depend on heavenly secret towers' information too. Therefore, every time the ranking day is coming, every major sects are constantly on the move. Causing ruckus everywhere, picking fights anyhow, the aim is to increase their influence. Sword asking day, they named the end less sword fights in the three days before the ranking day is sword asking day. Lower hundred sex, however, usually the sex that are busier on those days would be the top few sex in the lower hundred sex. As the smart ass like you would ask, why so? The reason being, they can't keep losing, they're not like those bottom few sex. If they don't give it a go, how would they know if something would turn out more rewarding? Furthermore, in the lower hundred sex, there are only the top 10 sex that could really be given a rank of their own. Having a rank and not having one has a world's difference in how they were treated. After all, the strong blossom greatly, while the weak are like chicks fighting amongst themselves. Who would care about the first and second counting from the bottom? As for MO sect, they've been at the bottom of the ranks over the years. According to logic, they would have nothing to do with the sword asking day. But things are different now. Lu Chao Ge's valiant display of talent, such as ranking first in the sword sect training grounds, unlocking the power of heaven and earth, awakening sword intent, and so on. Second rank, Lu Chao Ge, any single one of those is enough to brag throughout the world. Therefore, this year's MO sect became the most promising sect, looked up upon by many. After all, if you can defeat the so-called Tian Xian world's number one new and rising little sect leader, then your reputation will greatly increase. Oh ho, you're also here to challenge MO sect sect leader? Yeah. Didn't you come as well for the same thing? Heh, after all, how strong can a second rank guy be? If we could win somehow, then it would be a big deal. There sure are many people who showed up. How dare the lot of you try to use our sect leader as a stepping stone in gaining fame? None of you have the right. Sect leader has said it already before. The skies in this world are too low for him. He wants to look up and go beyond that. That was so cool of him. When will I be as cool as the sect leader? But this time we'll surely be making a huge profit. M.O. Jin Mountain Senior Brother Luo Tong. Why have you come here? M.O. Jin Mountain, that's from the Upper Hundred Sect. Someone of that caliber is challenging our sect leader too? M.O. Jin Mountain, Luo Tong. I would have not come here originally. I was ranked 10 at the training grounds. Until that guy, that guy. He bumped me off the top 10 and I became number 11. M.O. Jin Mountain, Luo Tong. Tell me, y'all. How could I stand this? Of course not. Absolutely not. Exactly. Absolutely can't just stand by this. Huh? Quick, look up there. That's... Sword Sex Direct Disciple, Chen Shout Senior Brother Chen. To think he came too. Oh my gosh, how many more big shots will come to M.O. Sect? Senior Brother Chen is also here to challenge Sect Leader Lu? Sect Leader Lu's ability has gotten Senior Brother Chen's attention. I wouldn't dare. How could I? I'm not. Stop spouting nonsense. I'm not crazy. Who would come and challenge a real blessed child of the heavens? I came under someone's order not to challenge Sect Leader Lu. I'm here to record all of your sword asking process. Record? Someone's order? Could it be? M.O. Sex sword asking process has also attracted the attention of higher ups in sword sect. Then, if I manage to beat Lu Chauga and it gets seen by the higher ups of sword sect, wouldn't my sex rank up like crazy? Look at their expressions. It's as if they think they are sure to win. Are they really that dense? Since that's the case, how about I start some fire? This item was obtained by me and my senior brother Yu Yu when we explored a secret realm. It's a rare defense item. Since I've come here, let me add some fun for you guys. This bracelet will be the reward for your sword asking sessions. How about that? 
Senior Brother Chen, what you mean is, if I, if any of us won against sect leader Lu, you would give that bracelet to them? No. If anyone can force sect leader Lu to unsheath his sword, then this goes to them. All right. Let's go. What's there to be afraid of? It's just a mere second rank. Why would I be scared of him? Why is M.O. sect filled with so much mist? It's so hidden that I can hardly see clearly. Right. Is that M.O. sect's defense array? No. It's sect leader lose heaven and earth ability. What? Heaven and earth ability. That guy is this terrifying? Look in front of you. That's the M.O. sect's training area. Look. Are those M.O. sect's disciples? Such average-looking male disciples. But such goddesses for their female disciples. Sword sect direct disciple, Chen Shao greets Elder Dong Li. We greets Elder Dong Li with a young and pretty elder. How rare. The most vital point are those legs, they're insane. Sect leader, everyone's here. Okay. Spiritual wind skill, activated, you've waited for long, everyone. This back view, this guy, why is even just his back is so good looking? Disciple Chen Shao greets sect leader Lu. MHM. That guy is a promotional flyer that failed. Useless. He's so cold towards a direct disciple from the sword sect? How weird. Even though he's only a second rank in cultivation. Chen Xiao, are you here for sword asking too? If so, then I'm going to beat him to death later. This disciple doesn't dare to. I'm here under someone's order to record the sword asking session. I hope sect leader Lu allows it. Sure. What a waste that I can't beat him to death. The rest of the people here, are all of you challenging this venerable one? Yes, we hope sect leader Lu will be kind enough to enlighten us. Who will be first? Xi Jiang Sword Pavilion, Yang and seeks sect leader Lu's guidance. Mo Jian Mountain, Luo Tong would like to request to be first. Butterfly Reflection Sect, Chu Ying Ying asks sect leader Lu to be merciful. It doesn't really matter if I can win or not. I just wish that during the sword asking session, when the swords clashed, I can also cause some sparks to go off with sect leader Lu. No, I have to be the first. I said it first, so it's me. Let sect leader Lu choose himself. You guys can't decide. Enough. There are too many people. How about we do this in a more straightforward manner? Why would you give brothers such an opportunity? It's here, it's here. Senior Bother G, are you really interested in taking Chauga as your disciple? That depends on his performance today. This is a God-sent opportunity, Chauga you have to seize it properly. After all, Senior Brother G, is a sword cultivator just below the sword sovereign and the current sword sovereign's only junior brother. The second sword under the heavened Ji Chan Kong. Sword sex sword sovereign could take in a disciple to be their successor. But the previous Sword Sovereign took in two. Sword Sovereign, Chang Kong, which meant Ji Chang Kong was once a top candidate to succeed as the Sword Sovereign. The young Ji Chang Kong was far more talented than most people. He stood out more than the current Sword Sovereign, becoming the sole chosen one by the heavens. However, the real chosen one was often unparalleled. For many years, the Sword Sovereign was stuck in third rank, but one day he gained a sudden enlightenment and broke through two ranks in a day, jumping from third rank to fifth. Ever since then, Ji Chang Kong fell behind the Sword Sovereign by a gap. And due to this gap, Ji Chang Kong wanted to go against the Sword Sovereign more than anything else. Therefore, the two of them competed over everything for decades. If this Lu Chaoga is how Ning Ying has described him to be, then I must take him in as my disciple. As long as my disciple is better than your disciple, it indirectly means that I'm better than you. Senior brother, just you wait. Chauga, you must perform well this time. 
This is the strongest backing I could find for you within the sword sect. Your talent is not any weaker than you use. You only lack a great master who could rival the sword sovereign. Among the best four swordsmen in Qing Zhou, the most suitable one to be your master who has yet to accept a disciple would be the second best swordsman in the world. This guy's appearance is out of this world. Just appearance-wise, he has already won against Senior Brother's Disciple. A character of this caliber also looks at the appearance. In today's sword asking session, whoever can force me to step out of this long line will be considered a win against me. That face, is it one you can look directly at? This isn't legal. Sword Heart, whoever wants to challenge me up here, you'll need to unsheath your sword first. If you can't, then back off on your own. My sword, it's shaking, with just one look. Sect Leader Lu took one look at the swordsmen in the crowd and all of their swords couldn't stop shaking and couldn't be unsheathed. Don't record such things, please. Just record it, don't read it out. This innate ability of his sure is interesting. To think his innate ability is this strong. It's my first time seeing him unleash it at full power. Now, draw your swords. Stop. Hurry up and stop. Stop shaking. I can't hold you anymore. Why is it vibrating so much? How embarrassing. No, I can't unsheathe it. My sword spirit is this terrified, and it's resisting going against the enemy. No. I can't do it. There's no chance of winning at all. Your hearts have gone astray. This guy is quite interesting. Stop moving. I understand now. The problem isn't with my sword. It's me. Sword heart, solidified. Senior brother Yangan, he unsheathed it. He actually did it. He entered the sword heart realm. Not bad. I can grant you the chance to challenge me. I thank Sect Leader Lu for your guidance. But I'm giving up on the chance. The current me still does not possess the right. Shi Jiang Sword Pavilion Jiangan, thank you for the guidance. Shi Jiang Pavilion Jiangan received guidance from Sect Leader Lu and solidified his sword heart and also willingly giving up the chance to challenge him. I've long since solidified my sword heart and I can also contain my sword's trembling, but I, can I really win against Sect Leader Lu? M.O. Jian Mountains Luo Tong, your sword did not shake. You also have the right to challenge this venerable one. As expected of Senior Brother Luo Tong, a third rank strength is indeed different. Sect Leader Lu is only just a second rank, perhaps Senior Brother Luo Tong could really defeat him. I'll give you a chance to face me directly. What does he mean? The pressure is gone. Sect Leader Lu retracted his aura. Is he going easy on Senior Brother Luo Tong? Is he looking down at me? Please. Since you look down on me, then I won't show any mercy. M.O. Jin Mountains Luo Tong, this guy is too straight-laced. In my previous life's plot, Luo Tong was so straight-laced that he died really heroically. His sword is one that would choose to snap rather than bend. Even in the face of death, that man will continue to stand. And yet, such a well-known genius like him didn't die protecting a whole capital or even a town, but merely to three mortals who were escaping. For three mortals, a budding young talent was sacrificed. Was it worth it? I don't know either. But... From what I saw in my previous life, Luo Tong died with a smile on his face during the battle. But if... If Luo Tong had been a little stronger back then, he wouldn't have died along with that demon cultivator. Be prepared, this venerable will only slash his sword once. Okay. Slowed sound. So fast. With just one slash, he beat senior brother Luo Tong, who's in the third rank. With just one slash, I is he really just a second rank? That's the technique left behind by the first generation sword sovereign. Senior brother, Lu Chaoge gained a lot at the training grounds when he visited the sword monument. Not only he reached the realm of sword heart transparency, 
but also gained the slowed sound technique. He gained those at the Sword Monument? Then, aren't his gains even bigger than Senior Brother's Disciple, Yu Yu? Cough, cough, thank you for your guidance, Sect Leader Lu. Since you've come for sword asking, this venerable one will naturally give you a few pointers. Cough, cough, Luo Tong has indeed learned a lot. Thank you for your guidance. This injury is worth it. In this life, you will still run into that demon cultivator. Whether or not you can become stronger, it has to depend on yourself. Senior Brother G, what do you think of Charge? He's much, much stronger than me in the past and even my senior brother. Who would have thought I could still run into a child like this in my life? The heavens did not disappoint me. When I found out senior brother had taken in a disciple, it roused up the same thought for me. But to think the senior brother's disciple had the strongest attribute a swordsman could have flawless sword body. It's impossible to find any disciples who could top that. That's why I was forced to announce I'm not taking in any disciples. As long as I don't take in any disciples, then the senior brother wouldn't be able to say he won against me in terms of disciples. But it's different now. My disciple is stronger than yours, senior brother. Senior brother G seems pretty set on taking in Chauga as his disciple. Let me just give him one last push. Senior Brother G, have you seen Nan Wei recently? Recently, she stayed at M.O. Sect for a short while. Nan Wei met Chowga? That's right. And Nan Wei once talked about before reaching third rank, don't even think about forming a sword intent with him. That's not wrong. I did hear Senior Brother say that before too, and there has some truth to it. Then, do you know how Chowga replied to Nan Wei? Chauga said the Sword Sovereign was wrong. He said what? The Sword Sovereign was wrong? Ha ha ha. He's the one I'm looking for. He's the one. I'm taking him in no matter what. Whoever tries to snatch him will die. Is there anyone else who wants to get up here? If there's none, then today's sword asking session will. This presence? What kind of crazy strong cultivator is it? This presence is more terrifying than anyone I've come across before, even Auntie Ning. Who's this? To think someone interrupted my moment. Even facing the crowd backwards like I usually do. System, appraise. It can't even identify his name? If I unleash all my hidden tricks and put my life on the line, I should be able to save brother. But this distance, I don't think I can get there in time. What should I do? Chowga, little Li Zi, do not fret. Auntie Ning. Auntie Ning. This disciple greets Elder Ning. Chen Xiao is the sword sect's direct disciple, and he called that woman an elder. Is she an elder of the sword sect? But there's only one elder with the surname Ning in the sword sect. That body, that appearance, it's exactly the same as the rumors. See, could she be the sword sex elder, Ning Ying? Lu Chowga called her Auntie Ning earlier. Is he the nephew of the sword sex elder? Oh. Oh my god. Humph. It's him. To think he showed up here, sword sex vice sect leader, Ji Chang Kong. His position is second only to the sword sovereign, who is the ultimate character for all noob players to look up to. Disciple Chen Shao greets vice sect leader. Sword Sex, Vice Sect Leader? What day is it today? One of Ching Zhou's greatest four swordsmen came here personally? We ran into such an immortal like character in broad daylight. This can't be? Sect Leader Lu called Elder Ning as Auntie Ning earlier. The Vice Sect Leader also personally visited. Is this Lu Chaoga, the Vice Sect Leader's disciple? If that's the case, then it makes so much sense that we aren't able to pull out our swords in front of sect leader Lu. Furthermore, we are people who have crossed paths with the disciple of one of Ching Zhou's greatest four swordsmen. Aya, if that's the case, it's not wrong to have lost. I even benefited from this. This trip isn't wasted. I can't deny that this guy's looks are unparalleled too. If I had such a disciple standing next to me, I would look different when I go out as well. 
I can't deny that this senior's appearance is indeed quite unique. I've seen Ji Chang Kong in the forum before in my previous life. He was merciless and ruthless whenever he got involved, so people called him the squinty-eyed monster. Humph, kid, you're not bad. What Senior said is true indeed. Shouldn't you act humble at a time like this? Not hypocritical or overly courteous, just like me. What's going on? Are they meeting for the first time? So sect leader Lu has never been taught by him. Then how did he become so strong? This is too much. How can there be someone who's so capable without a master? Sword asking session has ended. You lot should leave now. What an amazing skill. He's moving us all with it. Ah. Master. I've been sent flying by the legendary swordsman once. It seems like there's something the legendary swordsman wishes to discuss with sect leader Lu. I'm really curious about what kind of thing they'll be discussing. Huh, senior brother Chen, aren't you a direct disciple of the sect? How come you're also sent flying? Could it be that senior brother Chen isn't all that important too? Ah, so embarrassing. With one wave of his hand, he sent so many people flying. Does he have something to tell me? This kid still doesn't get what I'm trying to say. Why isn't he kowtowing in gratitude and acknowledging me as his master yet? Chowga, you silly kid. You will ruin your chances if this goes on. No, this can't happen. Senior Brother G, this is Chow G E and Dong Lee that I've often mentioned to you. They're both very talented and are geniuses among the geniuses. Good interjection. Let me use this chance to drop more hints for this kid. MHM, I know. Throughout my entire life, having walked through many lands and seen far too many geniuses, there were even more people who wanted me to take them in as my disciples. However, I've yet to take in a single one. Do you guys know why? Can you tell why, Senior Brother G? Because there has yet to be anyone who can pass the rules and tests I've set out. Kid, you're not from our sword sick, but since Junior Sister Ning sees you as her nephew, I'll give you a chance. I'll break my own rules and take you in as my disciple if you pass my tests. How is it? Seems like Senior Brother G is great at making up lies on the spot too. I, Chowga, thanks Senior for your great generosity, but I already have a master. What? Chowga, why didn't I know about that too? It's true. In my system interface, I do have a master. Master Lu Ching Fong, if it's possible, I want that column to forever be labeled with only that grayed out name. Dad is incapable, I can't give you the best. But Dad only wishes for you two to live in health and peace together forever. Don't say that about yourself. Although you can't give us the best, you wouldn't give us the worst, right? Chicken thigh, that's the best. Furthermore, even though he's one of the four greatest swordsmen, he can't contribute much to my cultivation. For techniques, I have that little ghost in the coffin. Plus she might be related to Emperor Qing too. For leveling up, I can accumulate experience. There's not much I can use Ji Chang Kong for. But this connection between Ji Chang Kong and M.O. Sek would be really beneficial. I must take it. I got it. Domli, come here. Brother, no. Chowga, who exactly is your master? Auntie Ning, please don't ask anymore. Is he really strong? Yes, very strong. As a transmigrator, he was able to hit me whenever he wanted. That's too strong. To be able to say he's strong in front of me, wouldn't that person be the only person from the four greatest swordsmen who isn't in sword sect? No, it can't be that guy. Although I already have a master, there's such a thing in Qing Zhou called a master of one sword. I hope Senior can teach me a thing or two. What does this kid mean? Refusing to acknowledge me as his master, but want to earn a free lesson from me? That's right, Lu Chaogo wants to get a free lesson. In Tian Xian world, as long as you receive an NPC's guidance, you'll usually gain experience only. But if it's the guidance of an NPC from the 8th rank, then it'll automatically be seen as luck. 
and for that luck to be recognized as what kind of reward, it will depend on the conversion of the system. Furthermore, every person only has one chance in their life. Why is he still smiling? How is his skin thicker than me? Yet, the current Ji Chang Kong is feeling anger by the second as he realizes he's getting scammed for a free lesson. You sure are quite amazing. Tell me, why should I teach you anything? Because Senior G can still become my senior. Damn it. Brother wants to sell me off. I have to run. Senior G knows too, that even though the MO sect is small, I'm still the head of the sect. If I'm still a disciple myself, then it'll work out. But due to my current position, there are many things that I can't do even if I want to. Senior G doesn't know, but Xiao Li Zi's talent is not inferior to mine. In all these years, Auntie Ning also taught and guided her a lot. Stop talking, stop talking. If I become the disciple of the second sword of the world, then my name would be known throughout the entire Tianqian tomorrow. How will I live then? How will I continue to live peacefully on M.O. Sect? There'll surely be people coming to challenge me. Hold on. You brat, just hold on. You said you're the head of the sect, but isn't she the sect's elder too? If the sect leader can't be my disciple, why can the elder? No, no, it can't work. Senior, as the sect leader, I'll immediately take away Donley's elder position. Whatever, just do it. I'm tired already. Huh? Your cultivation. Huh? You also have sword heart and sword intent? That can't be. I almost overlooked all that. Ha ha ha, this is interesting. You siblings are truly out of this world. Huh? Shao Li Zi? Sword intent and sword heart? How much this pair of siblings hiding from me? He he he, this kid wouldn't lose out completely to you you. Furthermore, her foundation are well built and deeply rooted. I wonder how did she cultivate up to this point? This is quite weird. She doesn't have any seniors guiding her unlike you you who has seen your brother guiding him, doesn't that mean? She has an even higher learning ability than you you? A mere M.O. sect to have produced this pair of insanely talented siblings. Does the heavens favor M.O. sect this much? What else is Xiao Li Zi hiding? Why is Ji Chang Kong's expression like that? That's not right. This little brat, she can't be hiding more things from me than I can imagine, right? That gaze, it's as if she's saying, Brother, I don't want to have a master at all. I want to grow old and die peacefully in M.O. sect. I understand what you mean, but I won't let you do that. The future of Tian Xian world will become much more messy than you can imagine. We need to hurry up and become even stronger to stay alive. No one is more suitable to be your master than Ji Chang Kong. If I were to agree, then it wouldn't that be equal to one and a half. Then that's half times more than senior brothers you you, which means I'm half stronger than senior brother. He he, I sure am a genius for realizing that. Kid, are you willing to be my disciple? Huh, what happened to the test he mentioned? Brother, wouldn't bring harm to me. He must have other plans. There's no point if I continue to hide myself like this. Ha, huh, I can't let down brother's expectations and kind wishes for me. Donley receives senior's favor with utmost gratitude. Whoever rejects your offer truly knows no humility. Good, good. But senior, Don Lee has a request before that. Can we have some rule agreements before you take me in? Rule agreements? I, Ji Chang Kong, need to follow rules to take in a disciple? If this were to spread to others, then the number of people who would want to be my disciple would line up from the M.O. sect to the sword sect. Oh? What kind of rules would you have? Go ahead and say them, little girl. Senior, please come to the side and listen to me privately. Little Lizzie has grown up. Humph, aren't you the same? Brett, since when did you have a master? How could you not tell your aunt name? Huh? He he. Chowga has grown up. He's the head of a sect now. 
Chowga, I've never asked you two before bringing senior brother G here. Did I cause you two to be uncomfortable in any way? Auntie Ning didn't do anything wrong. We'll just have to see if little Lee Z can communicate well with senior G now and bring us good results. Fifteen minutes have passed just like that, isn't it just stating the rules? Why aren't they done even after fifteen minutes have passed? Another ten minutes have passed, they're finally back. Isn't it just basic rules? Why are there so many additional rules to those main rules? I'm a little curious, how did she convince Ji Chang Kong? This brat's gaze, don't tell me she just secretly exacted her revenge against me? Ji Chang Kong is also using a weird gaze to look at me. Did I become a pawn for Dong Li? Then, from today onwards, you are my disciple. I should give you a gift according to the way things are. Ahem, although the appearance isn't that good, this is the welcoming gift I have for you. Huh, that is, a life exchange. The method to craft this item has long since vanished. It's one of the few relics left behind from the older times. With each use, one is lost from the world. Throughout the entire Tianxian world, I believe there's hardly any left to be found. System appraisal. That amazing? Even the system can't detect its information. This item doesn't have much use. However, once it recognizes you as its master, it can die in your place once. Revival coin. Don Lee thanks master. With that item, Don Lee can avoid death once. Boy, you said you wanted a one-time guidance from me? This is an 8th rank cultivator's guidance. What will the system give me in return? Yes. After all, the world has never seen another 9th rank cultivator again after the first generation sword sovereign. This is a great chance to show my skills in front of my little disciple. Recently, demonic cultivation has been on the rise. What's going on? This place is at least 50 miles away from M.O. Sect. Is this the strength of an 8th rank? Brother, look over there. Where did they come from? Why did I not notice them? As expected of an 8th rank cultivator, he can randomly choose a lucky audience to be killed, too overboard. A few brats and an old man aren't much to be afraid of. But that woman. An old man that isn't much to be afraid of, she's a great cultivator. Huh? What's going on, that old man? How could that old man summon such a strong sword aura? This isn't normal. Run. Let's run. Lil Fishy, hurry up and run. What's wrong? Why can't I move, my body? It's like something is holding me in place. We got locked in place by that terrifying sword aura. Have you heard of the story about how I used to part the sea with a single sword slash? Of course we have. That story is so famous that even a three-year-old kid in Qingzhou knows about it. That year, the sea waves were fierce and looked like it was about to swallow thousands to millions of citizens. Sword God Is that legendary Sword God? After that incident, I've come to a newfound realization and created a new sword technique. Today, this is but a mere lake in front of me. Let me show you 1 slash 10,000 of that technique. However, don't focus too much on the image of my sword. This one technique is a result of my training and innate talent. Even if you want to learn it, you won't be able to master it perfectly. Little Lizzy might be able to do it, since your element is wind. Master. Everyone, take a close look. With this technique that I name as. All beings are equal. Am I worthy of dying under such an incredible sword aura? That, I didn't see a single thing. That's too fast. Plus, it's too cleanly cut. No wonder it's called all beings are equal, so it means everything will be crushed to powder with that technique, truly equal. Look above. 
Senior's technique earlier wiped out all the air in front. Kid, how much have you learned? Will this kid really give me any surprise? Lu Chaoga has entered the system interface at this time. You've received the guidance of an 8th rank sword cultivator, Ji Chang Kong. You will gain one reward voucher. Exchange. Exchange it for a reward now. The guidance of an 8th rank cultivator, what kind of reward will it be? Skill all beings are equal partial. Partial? I guess it's because this technique is tied to Ji Chang Kong's innate ability, so it can only be partial. What will I gain from exchanging this reward? 50% discount on leveling up your sword intent. Note, you may only use it for your current level. 50% discount on leveling up your innate supernatural ability. Note, you may only use it for your current level. Oh, it's a 50% discount voucher on leveling up my sword intent or sword heart. It usually takes about 2 million EXP points for one level up. Isn't this a free 1 million EXP points? Since they both give the same experience points, which should I choose then? Just as Lu Chaoga fell into a dilemma, Dong Li also entered a fixed state. Disciple, how much realization will you awaken? As your master, I'm looking forward to it. W what's going on? Little easy can't be that weak in terms of comprehension. That's not it. She's not just imitating the sword technique. She's trying to absorb and integrate it into her own power of wind, but unfortunately. Wait. I can't jump to conclusions yet. She succeeded in integrating it. Not bad, not bad. This level of comprehension, it's comparable to me in my younger days. My disciple is so amazing. I should at least let my senior brother know about this. Or else wouldn't it be such a waste? First subsection of the first rule, before my strength solidifies, you can't let others know I'm your disciple. My senior brother shouldn't count as others, right? Unfortunately, the other disciples' capabilities are far inferior and have limitations in their comprehension. However, their own time for a breakthrough might come in the future. I fully comprehended it. But next is to turn this all beings are equal into my own technique. I wonder how his brother doing. Huh? Back down. Sword Intent Breakthrough His sword intent formed in his first rank. Now in his second rank, his sword intent also reached the second stage. Chowga, Chowga. How much more will you do that no one in history has achieved, giving me such a scare? With that one sword slash of mine, he actually gained so much. That kid. Ha ha ha. Senior Brother G, what's there to laugh at? Junior Sister Ning. Didn't you tell me that this kid once told Nan Wei that the Sword Sovereign was wrong? Then, do you know what it means that having a breakthrough for his sword intent at second rank? What does it mean? Ha ha ha. It meant Senior Brother wasn't just wrong, but he's utterly and truly wrong. Senior Brother G still keeps thinking about such a thing. This kid's sword intent has broken through because of that one sword slash of mine. That means I'm the reason that senior brother is wrong. I won. Senior. Brother. Yup. My logic has no flaw in it. He, I gave this kid guidance. I'll spread the news far and wide too. If I'm only second rank now, then I definitely can't match up to brother anymore. Brother's getting more stronger. The feeling of a sword intent breakthrough is great. Sword Intent Level 3 requires 4 million EXP for breakthrough. Yes or no? The next level requires 4 million EXP. Isn't that too much? Sigh, it's so expensive. What would the system use those experience points for anyways? To raise fishes or something? Congrats, brother. 
Your sword intent broke through. Thank you, Senior, for your guidance. Brett, your comprehension ability sure is great. It's not far from me back then. Does that mean the younger you are still stronger? Both of you probably still need more time to fully digest what you learned earlier. During this time, I'll travel back to the sword sect first to handle some personal matters. Junior Sister Ning, are you staying here or are you going to follow me back? Senior Brother G, after the sword asking day, it'll be ranking day. Regarding the ranking arrangement of the 300 sects under us, both of us will have to participate in the meeting. Humph, it's just some procedures. How tedious. Fine then. Chowga, little Li Zi, Aunt Ning will come by to visit you again another day. Goodbye, Aunt Ning. Let's go. The fights today have ended. Everyone should try their best to recall Senior's technique earlier. It's more or less beneficial to your cultivation. Understood. Brother, how many ranks do you think M.O. Sect will go up this time? It's just a small matter. No need to overly worry about it. The ranking day three years after will be much more interesting. Three years later. Thankfully, Ji Chang Kong has left. Tonight is the day I'll feed the ancestor spirit my blood essence. If he's here, he might likely see through. Being a man sure is hard. Wanting to grow up when they're younger, but once they're older, they will become someone else's free resources. Tonight, I'm fated to be emptied yet again. Ching Zhou. This mountain wall is the entrance to the secret realm. But why is it that even with my talent and spending so much time, I still can't enter it? I even skipped going to observe Senior Brother Chowga's sword asking session too. Senior Brother Yu Yu, I've brought what you've asked for. How did the sword asking session at M.O. Sec go? Ha. Ha, e extremely, extremely. Extremely. It ended extremely fast. Senior Brother, watch for yourself. Senior Brother Chowga is as amazing as always. Especially that line, your hearts are all over the place. Downright impressive. Sigh, why are you sighing, Senior Brother Yu Yu? Senior Brother Chowga has gotten a lot stronger again. Senior Brother Yu Yu, please don't be discouraged. Then I'll work even harder. Accumulate more experience for future use. That's how it should be. Haha, -ha, I think sect leader Lu might have his name spread across the land after this though. Why? In the sword asking session today, vice sect leader and elder Ning went as well. Uncle also went? Sword sect, we greet the honorable sect leader. One of the four legendary swordsmen of Qing Zhou, sect leader of sword sect, Li Sui Fong. Meeting hall, take a seat, everyone. Senior brother G, it's time. Yes, yes. Senior Brother G, who always shows a sour expression on these kinds of occasions, why is he smiling so brightly today? Since everyone is here now, then please take a look at the rankings we've predetermined first. Senior Brother G usually wouldn't care about the rankings. He likely won't even flip through them. H he did. Is he looking for a name? His expression changed. What kind of rankings are these? Aren't they done randomly? Senior Brother G, who has never opened his mouth, finally spoke. Is Senior Brother G trying to get involved from now on? If my thoughts were to clash with Senior Brother G, that would be a huge problem. It seems like this year, it won't just be me who speaks up for them anymore. In regards to the ranking done by Sword Sect in the past years, we've always based it on their strength. If the elders have any differing opinions, they will have a match outside to settle it. Whoever wins will get their way. But this stubborn old man, except for the sword sovereign, even me, can't beat him. Since, even in the previous generations, his strength is almost on par with the sword sovereign to some extent. Senior Brother G, could you please tell us which part of the rankings you find an issue with? We can discuss it together first. Let's see who is he trying to help. M.O. Sect Lower 100 Sect, 
45th place, I have no opinion on other rankings, all except MO Sect. They're placed too low. MO Sect? I've never heard of them, which rank are they in? Do we really have such a sect in the 300 sects we handle? Sect leader of MO Sect, Lu Chauga. Currently in second rank, but had cleared the training grounds not long ago at a speed far faster than the second placer. At the Sword Monument, he entered the realm of Sword Heart Transparency. What? There's such a genius out there? Entering the Sword Heart Transparency at second rank. Not only that, he formed his Sword Intent earlier too. I was at M.O. Sect few days ago. I only showed him a few pointers, but his level of comprehension wasn't that far off from my younger days. His Sword Intent has reached second rank too. How is that possible? Sword Sovereign personally said that no one can achieve Sword Intent under 3rd rank. Achieving 2nd rank in Sword Intent at 2nd rank, that kind of talent is comparable to Sword Sovereign. Senior Brother Sword Sovereign once said, it's impossible to form Sword Intent under 3rd rank. But now, that kid has reached the 2nd rank of Sword Intent under my guidance. It seems like Senior Brother isn't just wrong this time, but he's utterly wrong. You are the only one who can criticize the Sword Sovereign like that. The Sword Sovereign is wrong. Is that young man really that frightening? I wonder if there are any more news about him. During the Sword Asking Day, M.O. Sex Lu Chauga single-handedly took on dozens of disciples. There are even third ranks who were unable to unsheathe their swords due to his aura. Luo Tong and Yangan, who managed to unsheathe their swords, willingly surrendered or couldn't take even one hit. Luo Tong, a disciple who has reached third rank. His sword intent is well formed too, yet he couldn't take a hit? Luo Tong, I know that name. He's well known in his generation, he was easily beaten? That second rank, is he really that strong? Even with sword intent and sword heart transparency, this is way too much. Senior Brother G, this Lu Chaoga's innate supernatural ability, is it related to spiritual soul? Yes. That's really rare to come across. Any cultivator who has yet to reach fifth rank has super slim chances of having any contact with spiritual soul. Who knew there's such an outstanding talent outside of our sect? Chauga and Domli have even more to show. Senior Brother G, then in your opinion, where should M.O. sect be placed under the lower hundred sect? Top 10. That can't be done. Senior Brother G, that can't be done. Although that Lu Chauga is immensely talented, the rankings are based on the sect's overall strength, not just their potential. Lu Chauga's cultivation base is still in second rank. Yeah, others will take us as a laughing stock if we did this. Oh no, Senior Brother G is getting angry. Senior Brother G, MO sex ranking is indeed lower than they deserve. But we should still follow the rules set by our ancestors. Sect leader has brought up our ancestors, which means he has more or less concluded the argument. Senior Brother G. Sure is asking for a lot. Although Chauga and Dongli are talented, Mo Sect has too few disciples. Then what do you suggest they rank? Little Li Z, no matter what, your master will give you a spot in the top 10 today. In my opinion, the bottom 90 ranks of the lower 100 sects will not need to be announced anymore. MO Sex Rank 41 will then also be not known. What's the point of making the ranking if it's not announced? That's right, are we not here to discuss the rankings? Different ranks will receive different resources. Was that not the meaning of it the entire time? The top 10 ranks will still be announced regardless. As everyone here knows, the top 10 ranks resources are greatly different from the other sex. Therefore, I plan to give MO Sec the same resources and treatment of a top 10 rank. If there's any resources lacking, then I'll personally add on to it. How does everyone think about that? T that seems doable. The rankings for the lower 100 sex need not be announced so clearly in the first place after all. Right, right. This is the right way to approach it. The sect leader is truly wise and generous. Little Li Z, if you were to show your strength a little more, then your master could have helped you got top one in the lower hundred sections, but this is the best solution right now. 
Sure, we'll do as the sect leader says then. That's great, that's great. Ahem, everyone. M.O. sex potential is as clear as day to everyone here. What exactly will happen in three years is an unknown variable. How about? We have a bet. Are we really having a meeting here? What were we supposed to discuss again? It has completely sidetracked. Reputation plus 100, reputation plus 100, reputation plus 100, what the hell? Why is our reputation value going up like crazy? Did it glitch? Brother, I have something for you. What is it? Here. You're giving it to me? Yes. Brother, take it. My younger sister sure is a steady person. All of her dreams are related to longevity. From her sword's name to everything else, it's named longevity too. And now, she's yet again trying to give me this life exchanger doll that can substitute one death. Life exchanger doll can replace the owner's death once. In her heart, as her brother, I've surpassed even the weight of her own life. Even though she's so scared of death herself. Why are you giving it to me? Isn't this all because of brother's personality? How can I be assured of how you handle things? I'm fine. I don't plan on leaving the mountains anyways. I can research more on spell arrays, making the protection array around MO sect even more secure. Furthermore, I'm going to learn how to refine weapons from Ant Ning so that I can make more defensive items to use for myself. And, and, I'm going to learn alchemy. Many spiritual pills nowadays have amazing effects. I have all sorts of ways, so you can keep this, brother. I may be cultivating the way of longevity, but the longevity I want is to live a long life with brother. Take it back. If you don't want to get spanked like when we're kids. Humph. Brother, you might not win against me now. I'm still your brother and also the sect leader. Ah. Humph. And don't even think about sneakily stealing my blood essence and dripping it to the doll so it recognizes me as its owner. Humph. I'm not going to talk to you anymore. Brother isn't as fragile as you think. I'll definitely live a long life with you. Today is the day where the rankings are released for the 300 sects under the sword sect, but who I'm talking about is M.O. Sex Sect Leader, who conquered 100 people all on his own during the sword asking session. Winning against 100 on his own, truly like a god. Especially during the moment when he pressured everyone with just one gaze, asking if anyone could unsheathe their swords. Your hearts, all of them have gone disarrayed. Great. Amazing. Yeah. What a great story. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Sect leader is so much cooler than how he said it. The storyteller didn't even express one slash ten thousand of how cool he really was. Sect leader asked that I bet on M.O. Sect and every gambler den, and now we've really won big time. Then isn't M.O. Sect Sect leader the darling of heavens, the strongest among second ranks? Exactly, exactly. Aside from Sword Sect senior brother Yu Yu, almost no one else can compare to him in the younger generation. Truly, what an impressive generation. This is because Yu Yu has exceeded fourth rank, as well as having his flawless sword body supporting him. If they're both second ranks, then sect leader Lu would be number one. What does that mean? That number one belongs to us, Ching Zhou. That our sword cultivation is the strongest here. Ha ha ha. ha. Sect leader's name has spread wide across Ching Zhou. When can I be as cool as him? In the far, far future, his wish had come true and his name became a legend, well known across generations. But that will be a story for later. M.O. Sect's neighbor, Chiu Shue Sect, Sai, if I had known, I would have tried harder in the past. I would have clung to Lu Chao Ge at that time regardless, then at least I could get a bit more resources now, right? Chiu Shue Sect leader who's skilled at clinging to others, Lin Long, now, he's already the strongest in the second ranks, I can't even go near him anymore. 
Sword Sex Senior Sister has come to distribute resources. Chil Shue Sect, Lower Hundred Sex, Lower Rank. Lower Grade Resources. I really want to ask for MO Sex Ranking. Humph. Why didn't they choose me to go to MO Sect? Why must I distribute resources to Chil Shue Sect? Even though I really wanted to witness MO Sect Sect leaders' coolness in person. Dare I ask? How is MO6 current situation? They should be receiving higher grade resources. Higher grade resources? But our sect leader himself had said he'll cover the lacking resources, which will be three years of high quality resources for MO sect. What? When the sword asking session ended, Vice Sect Leader Ji Chang Kong visited MO sect. And now the rankings have ended, the sect leader Li Sui Fong is giving them such generous resources. How much does Sword Sect favor MO Sect? The sky we're looking at is far too small. Perhaps, he really depended on his own strength to conquer this land. These are the spiritual stones and money that I've won from following Sect Leader's orders. As expected of Sect Leader, we can hide in the mountain for a long time more. So much money. We can buy a lot of delicious food. Huh, where's Sect Leader? He's waiting for Sword Sect's disciple at the entrance. I should quickly go too. Huh, where's brother? Why is he not waiting here? Oh no. The disciple responsible to distribute resources is here. MO Sect Sect Leader, ranked upper ranks in the lower hundred sections, personally compensated by the Sect Leader, three years of high quality resources. High quality resources? Shouldn't the upper ranks only get good quality resources? Is MO Sect Sect leader here? We're doomed. Where's brother? On such an important day, especially for these resources, he should at least be on time. Sword Sect Sect leader Li Sui Feng's direct disciple He Ying, master must have judged wrongly. Being late to the ranking announcement, what good is someone like this? As expected, men can't be depended. I'm MO Sex Elder, can I take it in place of? MO Sex Sex Leader, Lu Chao GE is here. This man. MO Sex Sex Leader, Lu Chao GE is here. I used to think that I'm only obsessed with swordsmanship and had no interest in men. But it seems I was simply too young back then. Is there anything else? Why yes. May I ask if the young lord has a fiancé? No, no, no. V Vice Sect Leader asked me to give this to you too, I. I. I shall take my leave. As expected, no one can withstand this astoundingly beautiful face of this venerable one. A letter from the master? Hat disciple said we are given high-grade resources earlier. Could it be that master secretly helped us out? We'll know if we read it. Master, I didn't do much for the rankings this time, only managing to get some high-grade resources for you. However, what's coming in three years' time will be big. He's bragging, isn't he? Didn't do much, but give us high-grade resources just like that? This is the treatment given to only the top ten of the lower hundred sex. I have also started a bet between the elders. I placed my bet on MO sect that you guys will definitely be in the middle hundred sex and placing in the top fifty at least. If I win, it'll go to you guys. But if I lose, it'll count on me. Bet? How much can we win? Master, how much did you bet? Not a lot. Just 20,000 spiritual stones. 20,000? 20, 20,000 spiritual stones. If there's a must, I have to expose a little of my cultivation now. This isn't to earn money, but for MO6 future. Sword Sect Nameless Mountain. At this moment, the person who started this insane bet is doing an important thing. I'm here. He he. Senior brother, come out and admit your mistake. Chan Kong is here. 
You haven't visited your senior brother in so long. Sword sect, sword sovereign, the best swordsman in the world. Senior brother, you're wrong. He he. Yes, it was my fault. You should now ask where your fault lies. All right, all right. Do let me know, where am I wrong, junior brother? Didn't you once say that before reaching third rank, there's no way someone can form their sword intent? Don't pretend you have never said that. You did. All right, all right. I did, I did. Then, let me tell you now. There really is someone in this world who really did that under third rank. And it's under my guidance. He reached the second level of sword intent while only being in second rank. Junior brother, you have really done something never seen before in history. Logically speaking, this is something that's possible. With the cultivation of a second rank and their understanding, being able to form sword intent would have already broken the regular law of nature. Yet, he managed to reach a level higher than even that. Truly impressive. He he he. I already said you've thoroughly been wrong. I'm curious, what is this young man's name? M.O. Sect Sect Leader, Lu Chao Ge. M.O. Sect Lu Chao Ge. Oh? If even senior brother has heard of his name before, then that kid is. Junior brother, can you tell me more about him in detail? So you don't actually know him? Um, the Sword Sovereign has stopped caring about the things in the world for many years now, only being in contact with his disciple and his daughter. Yet, those two have chosen to hide every information about Lu Chao Ge from him so far, truly, the mortal enemy of Lu Chao Ge on his path of raising his reputation points. M.O. Sect Lu Chao Ge, that's all. Do you understand? Do you need me to repeat it again? I've understood it well. Eh? Did you not hear clearly that my half-disciple is stronger than you, a sword sovereign's disciple? Sure, let me repeat it again for you. You're the one who wants to repeat it. If he was born a hundred years earlier, I'd be very happy. Humph, it seems senior brother doesn't see me as an opponent. Fortunately, I still have you. Humph, that's more like it. Senior brother, there's something else too. But you need to help me keep it a secret for now. If it's a secret, it's best if you don't tell anyone, not even me. No can do. You must be my listener. All right, all right. Please do tell, junior brother. Actually, there's a pair of talents in M.O. Sect. Aside from Lu Chao Ge, there's his younger sister Lu Dong Li as well. Her talent isn't any lesser than his. And for this Lu Dong Li, I've accepted her as my disciple. I believe she can at least match up to you, you in the future. 1.5 versus 1 Based on the amount, you've already lost, senior brother. This is a good thing. Why is there a need to keep it a secret? It's a long story, so let's skip it. Senior brother, shouldn't you be feeling down right about now? Why should I be? This is great news for the sword cultivation world. Do you think I would wish for us to not have a successor? Then, do you want to follow me to M.O. Sect and have a look? No, I want to leave the mountain on a trip. If there's a chance another day, I'll go with you then. Trip? Where are you going? Nothing much. I just want to go on a leisure trip and have fun. I haven't left the mountains in decades. I should go and have a look at the world. The skies are changing. It's a good thing to gain that much resources in one go. But Senior G's 20,000 spiritual stones mustn't be lost either. I have to find a way to increase MO6 number of members as soon as possible. And at the same time, do not waste any resources. Three days left until the beta testing. It has to be the new players then. It won't just be 10,000 players for beta testing. It'll be much more than that, entering the game at once. When there are more people, their titles will change too. For example, the end day of the monsters, the villagers errant boy, the best nutrient for bosses, the best tool for sect leader Lu. But I don't require that many. It's not like I'm going to eat them. I will need to filter through them to get the better players. 
These are the marks left behind by the younger Lu Chao Ji Yi and Dong Li. The marks were stopped at this point because the ones drawing those marks are no longer here. Never too late. You're looking forward to that day as much as I do too, right? Soon. It'll be soon. I'm feeling hungry. I kind of want to eat a few little girls. You also want to eat humans too, right? The tender, sweet taste of little girls, yum. Oh well, just be a bit more patient. The gathering will start soon. Let's not make any trouble for now. After a few days, we'll be able to find a few villages and eat to our heart's content. It's her? Those legs, it really is her. If not for that shitty pair from M.O. Sect injuring me, the chance to break through to rank 5 wouldn't have fallen into your hands. You damn bitch, how dare you steal my chance away? What? Where are your manners when meeting a messenger? Chi Yao greets the Lord Messenger. In the past, carrying the bloodline of the demonic snake beast, I was only one step away from reaching rank 5. I was even favored by the higher ups back then. But only because I ate a few little girls, I got chased to death by that damned pair. In the end, I was heavily injured. Although I killed that damned pair at that time, my rank realm dropped and completely lost favor from the higher ups. If I can return to my peak one day, I will definitely ruin M.O. Sect and eat all of M.O. Ching Feng's children. Originally, I could have had this pair of legs under my command, but now, who would have thought that the gathering at Ching Long River this time would be organized by me? I didn't expect that the Lord Messenger would come in person. Chi Yao, you're still as bad as ever at masking yourself. You seem to really like my legs? The possessiveness and resentment in your eyes are enough to burn my entire body. I can't wait to kill you. Lord Messenger, don't. Please don't. Don't be so nervous. I won't kill you just yet. I came this time to ask you to be my assistant. If you agree, I will grant you one of the three blood droplets of the dragon beast that was given to me. H. How could that be? The dragon beast's blood, how could you have any left? I've only taken two drops. There's still one more left. According to what I know, even a half drop can heal your injuries. And the other half can help you recover your demonic energy. It really is the dragon beast blood. But, why are you helping me? We are enemies. Aren't you afraid of me growing stronger and scheming against you? Are you capable of that? Ha ha ha. You have no idea what I've earned these past years. That and that. Heavenly Secret Tower. It's not my intention to return empty-handed, but the vice leader of the sword sect showed up personally, someone as powerful as that showing up at M.O. Sect. Even if I return empty-handed, the tower leader should understand, right? So annoying. Hey Ting, my first chess piece. How could he become M.O. Sect's disciple? What I saw was a demon king who could bring despair to the entire Qing Zhou. What I saw was a demon king who could bring despair to the entire Qing Zhou. But now, but now, he took in the demon king that I personally placed there for years, but to be reduced to the role of errant boy. I didn't expect the tower leader to be this mad. Will I, Xian Ji, die here today? B but I, I was so close to him. Just one more step away. To be able to have my way with him. If there's another life, Xian Ji wants to. T that's not right. I placed this chess piece according to the heaven's instructions. How could it so easily be ruined by someone else? That Lu Chaoga, there must be something about him. Could it be that brat named Lu Chaoga is the one who plays along on the board that this venerable one has been searching for many years with difficulty? Player on the board. That's right, he must be. How else could he so easily and quickly break through my plans? I thought I was acting low enough already. By sending a woman to his side to personally tempt him. 
that was already cheating. Yet that brat actually painted his own color and marked his territory onto my chess pieces, turning them into his. Making Hei Ting be an errand boy, was it to insult this venerable one? Humph. You may be a player on the board, but don't you think you're being too naive? You can't easily change someone's true nature. Someone's born to be a demon. You'll eventually be betrayed by your own disciple. And by then, the winner will still be me. Xian Ji. I, I am here. I is this the end. Get up. This servant is willing to die, huh? You don't need to continue getting closer to Lu Chao Ji Yi anymore. But you'll need to observe and watch over M.O. Sex situation. Every month, no, report to me every 15 days. Yes. Xian Ji understands. That's great. I am still alive, and I can still approach sect leader Lu from now on. Just from thinking about it, my heart is beating fast again. Lu Chaoga, who has become a target, is currently cultivating happily while in pain. Brother, are you cultivating? I have something to report. Power of water to remove blood stains, refusal to not look cool at all times, what is it? MO6 protective barrier has been set up. Errand running disciples and outer disciples accommodations have also been prepared. Alright, let's go have a look. To prepare for the new players that will be arriving, tasks like these are unavoidable. Brother, we don't have many people. Why must we build another area for our disciples accommodation out of Danqing Mountain? We don't have them now, but we will very soon. Brother wants to take in more disciples? The disciple would be beaten, followed by the senior brother. Next, it'd be their master. If brother takes in many more disciples, then won't we be in danger? Brother, how about adding another layer of protection barrier outside? We're only separating them based on ranks. There's no need for that. What is this? He, he this is the barrier I set up. I, I just made it slightly harder to break through. Just a bit. A bit? A sword cultivator's body is not weak. Plus this is only one layer of array, yet it was able to block the world's strongest rank 2 body? This is just a barrier to separate them, anyone can enter at ease as long as they hold this plate. I'm very curious. If even a simple barrier like this can be so strong, what about the protection barrier for M.O. Sect, Elder Dong Li? At the moment, it can only hold back cultivators in the 5th rank and below. Up to 5th rank already? That's great. I didn't notice at all when Master invaded last time. My barrier was completely useless. It feels so insecure and unsafe like this. Unfortunately, I can only check these three attributes, luck, swordsmanship talent, and core bone. Little Li Zi's talent must be quite extraordinary in other aspects. If I could see it, I'm sure it would be. Wait, Dong Li must be a top character with all 9 point stats. Luck 9, Swordsmanship Talent 9, Core Bone 9, Spiritual Energy 9, Divine Consciousness 9, Spell Arrays 9. Yu Yu is the main character of the world with certain outstanding attributes. While Dong Li is a main character of the world with well-balanced top attributes. My younger sister has the quality of a main character. It'll be our little Lizzie's birthday in a few days. Do you still remember our promise? I do. I will follow brother out on a trip this year. I'll bring you to kill. All right. Then I will have to prepare a few more things too, since the public beta test will begin soon. HM, what is it? The first step will start with acquiring some techniques for the disciples. I'll be leaving the mountains in a few days. I'll leave M.O. Sec to you by then. Sure. I'll collect some purple moon badges for you this time around. Really? Although I'm really curious why you need them, but I think you can't recall anything now anyways. That's right, I can't recall. Then I'm sure you know how it works. I'll give you the badges, you have to give me something in return too. Ugh, you, what do you want? I want cultivation and swordsmanship techniques. HM. 
I have these, but nothing suits you more than the one I've given you before. It's not for me, but it'll be helpful for me too. The public beta test has started. It's here. Players may freely log into the game. We'll be welcoming the Tianxian World 1.0 version, the Undead Group. The world will start to move soon. Loading. Loading complete. This is the Flying Bird City. It's the place that man appeared, the one who blew up the forum. I really am too lucky. I can't believe I was able to have this as my starting point. How realistic. Is this really a game and not another reality? Ouch. What are you doing? It hurts. I just wanted to see if this world would really have the sensation of pain. It seems like this word is indeed very real. Next up, I'm going to start to cultivate. And level up. Let this be our second world. Brother, is this really fine? There's a sudden influx of people with a spiritual cord down the mountain. Due to Lu Chaoga performing too well in the closed beta, MO sect became the talk among the players despite being a low-ranked sect. So many of them showing up at once, are they truly into cultivation? Furthermore, if we accept that many disciples, how will we sustain ourselves with our limited resources? I've told you before. They don't require resources and they can even do free labor for us. Furthermore, aren't they trying to become disciples and acknowledge us as their master? That will have to depend on my approval first. It wasn't easy walking on foot from Flying Bird City to Danqing Mountain. But why can't we even enter the entrance? We are at least MO6 errand running disciples. How come we are blocked out with these guys outside too? Hey, is there anyone there? We are here to be disciples. Open up. Sect Leader Lu. I know you're in there. Open it up, please. A bunch of idiots. Do they think yelling would do anything? After the closed beta, I made a comeback to my live stream career. I jumped from being the top 10 female streamer to number one. And the start of everything was thanks to him. It was him who pushed me to my peak. No matter what, I must cling to him. If I could also push him up to his peak, then our relationship should be considered stable, right? Due to being MO6 errand running disciple in the closed beta, I finally managed to get rid of that nickname, the rich second generation boy who only knows how to spend money. Vice Guild Leader, whether or not our guild can stand out in Tianxian world, it will depend on you. That's right, Vice Guild Leader, you are our only hope. Vice Guild Leader, you must bring us all into MO Sect. The feeling of being depended on by everyone, it's a completely different feeling from buying it with money. No matter what. I must become MO Sect's inner disciple, no, a direct disciple of Sect Leader Lu. No one can turn down the chance to appear cool in front of others. Quick, look at the forum. Someone posted big news about Sect Leader Lu. Shocking. MO Sect Sword Asking Day. 8th rank Big Shot showed up at MO Sect. Crazy. Lu Chaoga single handedly dozens of big league cultivators. He wasn't even panting. Terrifying. With just one glare, he made over dozens of people unable to draw their blades. These headlines, why are they even more intense than we are? It seems like this world really is different. Even without players entering, it can still function on its own. Perhaps, the future of this world could even affect ours. If so, then I must become Sect Leader Lu's companion. Regardless of what tricks I need to use. Bring these wooden plates to our 30 errand running disciples. These are the wooden plates that can allow them to enter MO Sect, but only up to the outer layer. Understood. Then how about the others? Bring them for a trial test. If they pass it, they will be an errand running disciple. If not, let them enter the Mr. Ray. Yes, this disciple shall go then. The reason I set up two tests is to filter out two types of people. One, the skill-based people. Those must be accepted. And two, the Mr. Ray is for those with a higher level of comprehension. With those, their future won't lose to the skill-based ones. 
I will not let even a single opportunity slip through my hands. After all, you are all my useful tools. No use, it's impossible to break in. Not even biting it works. Even a rock can't smash it open. How exactly can we enter M.O. Sect? Everyone, stop it. I am M.O. Sect's disciple, Luo Bing. How pretty. Isn't this an incarnation of what pure desire is? M.O. Sect disciple. The young lord has always liked being high profile when doing anything. There must be a reason for it. If so, I should learn a little from him too. All M.O. Sect's errand running disciples, listen up. These are wooden plates given by the sect. From now on, you may freely enter and leave M.O. Sect's outer area. Amazing. This looks incredible. Is this the greatness of a beautiful big shot cultivator? Senior sister, can the rest of us pay a visit to the sect leader? You'll naturally get a chance to do so after becoming an inner disciple. For now, don't think too much about it. In other words, we can see sect leader Lu every day once we become an inner disciple. Then even if I die, I have to succeed. Sis, do you think this is legit? Let's hurry up and go start a mission. We're already much ahead of them. Let's go. We're coming in. How about us? We came from a long way, that's right. To see sect leader Lu, we walked for hundreds of kilometers. Sect leader has prepared trials for you guys too. If you pass them, you will become an errand running disciple in MO sect. Really? That's great. Where are the trials? Let's start right away. Come, I will lead you to the trial area. M.O. Sex Luo Bing is giving out a sect quest. Will you accept? Sect quest. Sadly, we still can't go see sect leader Lu right away. There's something to profit out of missions. Don't complain about that. The group of errand running disciples started helping Luo Bing at lightning speed. Stand in a line. One by one. This is your number. Number 213. It seems I am no longer required here. I can go back to report to the young lord. Although there are that many people, all of them look average. But that might be a good thing too. At least the young lord won't be tempted by this bunch of people. I have instructed them to enter the trial grounds as the young lord told me to. As for the ones who failed, they will try their luck at the Mr. Ray. The 30 errand running disciples are maintaining the order of things there. As expected of the ever so detailed little secretary. She made use of the tool men we have and knew how to organize them. That warms my heart. Sect leader, master. I still have something else to report. What is it? Something's wrong? If there's anyone who looks like instant trouble, kick them out right away. That's not it. But, there's so many of them, yet all of them looked plain and average. Not a single one was ugly or pretty. If that's the case, then none of them has the potential of becoming my sister-in-law. MHM, this bunch of people is great. Her gaze, why does it seem like an owner who is afraid of her pet running away? Of course they appear like that to you guys. Cause all of their likability with you two are at O. If the likability increases in the future to the max, even if they are ugly, you will still think they are pretty due to the filter. Which also means, even if they are as ugly as a pig, if their likability is full, then they will appear like a goddess. It's the same logic for handsome guys too. This is what it means for beauty is in the eye of the beholder. But it's different for me. Everyone looks the same to me. We are so close to ranking up into an 8th rank sect. What else are we lacking? Reputation value 7891 slash 1000 fulfilled. Number of disciples 104 out of 100 fulfilled. Cultivators in the second rank and above two-thirds unfulfilled. We're still lacking one disciple above second rank. It seems I was too lenient with Hei Ting and the rest. I should keep an eye on their progress. Speaking of which, Donley has a few disciples. Why haven't they returned to the sect yet? Sect leader, there are many people who have passed the trials already. Should we take them all in? Give me a moment that, yes. 
there's only two things to note when new players join the sect. One, are they strong? Second, are there any benefits? MO sect certainly has to consider these two things. They have to be extraordinary as well. Next, I will distribute the bag that the sect leader has provided for you guys. It's here. It's here. Benefits for the newbies. Is there a uniform? That'd be a character skin. Any techniques? Uniform. What will it look like? Quite cool. There's a separate one for each gender. What a good looking uniform. With such pretty senior and junior sisters, we sure are lucky. I wonder if the inner disciples' uniforms are even bolder. Huh, there's a storage ring too. This item is made by Lu Chowga. This is made by sect leader Lu. Oh God. To think we got equipment personally made by sect leader Lu. M.O. sex treatment is too good. If we become an inner disciple, what more will we get? Sect leader Lu, no matter what, I will get to you. They seem to be a bit overly touched. Such a small tool, I made it from the leftover materials given by Aunt Ning. Retracts divine consciousness. Plus, it only took a wave of my hand. Then, what's next is to get some benefits out of these tools as well. System, send out MO sex sect quest. The sect quest is the easiest way to read my benefits. Every day, I can gain a huge amount of experience without doing anything. MO sex sect quest has been sent out. All errand running disciples may accept this quest. Quest info, take care of the spiritual tree. The experience points will be distributed evenly among those who have succeeded. If everyone can achieve it, then the quest distributor will gain 100,000 experience points. I can earn 100,000 experience points every day, and this is only a quest while we're a 9th rank sect. Once we reach 8th rank or 7th rank, it would be different. My tools, if you guys work hard, then you'll get to enjoy how it feels to skyrocket to success with me. Sect quest, quest info, take care of the spiritual tree. Everyone can gain 200 experience point. It is limited to the first 500 people for now. Number of people who has accepted the quest, 531-500. The number is still increasing. Only the first 500. Fuck. I must gain those experience points. Hurry. What are I still looking at? I have to go do the quest now. Spiritual tree. Drink up. Drink. No matter what. What's going on? Shocking. M.O. Sect's errand running disciples received a bag personally made by M.O. Sect Sect Leader by Lu Chowga's storage ring at a high price. You can bid as high as you want. Well-known streamer story with Lu Chowga. I'm sorry everyone, I joined M.O. Sect. The ring is mine now. And at this time, the forum has once again blown up because of Lu Chowga's tactics. Damn it. Why did they get M.O. Sex uniform and ring before I could even get there? Whatever, I must hurry up and get there now. I want to receive a ring personally made by Lu Chowga too. As expected, no one understands these noob players more than I do. Next, I must think of how to level up our sect. To level up to 8th rank sect, you must gain 500,000 experience points from sect quest every day. 500,000 every day? Then won't I get 15 million in a month? I have to be stricter with my disciples then. But before that, it'll soon be Dong Ji. I'll be leaving the mountains and hopefully I can get more soul jade shards back. I want to join MO Sect. Me too. Sect Leader Lu, please accept us. Hurry up and leave. Leave. We can't fit that many people here. It doesn't matter if we can't fit in the car, we'll just cling to it. If that doesn't work, we'll be on the car roof instead. There will always be a way. This, this is. Ching Zhou players have officially exceeded 5 million people. The main plot at Ching Zhou has been unlocked. Will you accept it? Yes, no. Main plot? You have accepted the quest. 
sword of Haiti's current progress, 6.7%. If the progress increases every 10%, you can unlock a huge reward. The reward will be tripled for those who show outstanding progress. The main plot just started, but there's already 6.7% progress? Who did that? During the closed beta, I didn't hear of anyone who's that amazing. I should hurry up and look at the forum. I wonder if the other areas are facing the same situation. If not, then I'm going to. Turn viral again. It seems like the other three areas don't have it. This main plot, does it have anything to do with sect leader Lou? Ah. I want to see him again. I miss him. Seven days later, MO sex outer area. Today, I'm one of the 500. I can get the experience points. I'm about to level up soon. I'm stronger than y'all. Humph. What's so great about that? Becoming my husband's errand running disciple is enough for me. That's my husband. Not yours, shameless. Look there. Am I hallucinating? I think I see sect leader Lou. He looks exactly like the picture. Spiritual wind, activated, disciples, do you recognize this venerable one? It really is sect leader Lou. It's him. I recognize him, there's no way I'll forget his face. He looks amazing. It really is him. It's the real sect leader Lou. It's a live one. Not just a photo. Hurry up and record it. Let the others on the forum feel jealous to death. What's going on? I can't move my legs. It's as if there's some kind of energy preventing me from getting closer to him. My body is s so heavy. How can I let you guys so easily approach me, the chosen one of Tian Xian world? Power of water, water weight. You guys did well, so this venerable one will allow you to ask me three questions. This is the opportunity this venerable one has given you to quench your curiosity. Sect Leader Lu, I want to ask, I want to ask too, I want to ask, I really want to know. Silence. A amazing. To think there's such a spell. I can't move my tongue, my husband sure is great at controlling tongue, it's exciting just thinking about it. I said only three questions. I'll choose the ones to ask. You. Sect leader, are you saying do you have a partner now? What kind of question is that? What's going on inside her head? This venerable one is solely devoted to cultivation. Then. This is a question that most female players care about the most. By asking this, I'm sure I'll go viral again. Furthermore, it means the sect leader is. He's still single. I have a chance. Ask me. Ask me. Lord sect leader. I'm someone who has five like ability points with you. Second question, you. A am I unworthy? Sect leader Lu, what kind of requirements do we need to meet for you to take us as your direct disciple? Become an outer disciple first. So it seems that to have the opportunity to become sect leader Lu's direct disciple, we must first be promoted into MO sex outer disciple. We've acquired the right direction to work towards. We shall chase after the goal of becoming sect leader Lu's direct disciple. This question isn't too bad. Looking at all their gazes, you can clearly tell they're really fired up. This is like. Drawing a big picture for myself. Is my likability fake? Why didn't sect leader Lu pick me? You'll ask the last question. Sect leader Lu chose me. As expected, the likability is useful after all. Sect leader Lu wanted to choose me for the finale. I must ask a great question so as not to disappoint his expectations. Why is he dragging it out? How about I choose someone else? Sect leader, what does Sword of Hades mean? This brat, that's a great question. Is he crazy? What kind of question is that? The main plot just started. What would sect leader Lu know? What an idiot. You just wasted a valuable question. Isn't it better to ask if he really has a peerless body? Do not ask questions like these. The time is not ripe yet. That expression and tone, it's as if he really knows something. Definitely. 
Amazing. To think he dug a big bomb. Does it mean M.O. Sect has something to do with the main plot? As expected of the Chosen One. We came to the right place. We'll end it today. This is really great. We got such explosive news in a row. We have a chance of becoming Sect Leader Lu's direct disciple if we become an outer disciple first. Sect Leader Lu knows something about the main plot. We came to the right place. And the last thing. Sect Leader Lu is still single. I want to post it in the forum now. I want to be the first to expose this news. Me too. Me too. All of you, stop it. Only the one who asked the questions has the right to post it. Who cares about you? I want to be the source of such explosive news. Is this the idol effect? Even though I hardly did anything. These young people sure can't hold it in. Domli, are you ready? Brother, I'm ready now. The day has finally come. Oh right, brother. How did you find out about this? I used some tricks. System counts as my trick too, I guess. Okay. Brother, do you think our parents will feel like we took too long? After all, it's been so many years. You should know their personalities well. They might even hope that we never exacted revenge for them. Brother, do you think they are looking after us from the heavens? They are. They won't just be seeing us exact revenge for them, but also how I will raise up M.O. sect as a great sect. Originally, they could have seen it for themselves, a sight that M.O. sect has never achieved. Ancestors, you can rest assured. M.O. sect will reach a much greater height than any of you can imagine. He, he. My parents will be witnesses. They can prove it. How many times have I said it? Stop smirking like that. Ouch, ouch, it hurts. Get away from my son. The two of us are not capable, so why can't we at least allow him to make such a noble wish? Ouch, ouch, it hurts, ha ha ha. Your dad doesn't have much talent in terms of cultivation. Truly, I've wronged our ancestors. But if M.O. Sect can truly be rebuilt in the hands of you too, then I can at least stand up straight in front of our ancestors when I meet them. What Lu Chauga didn't know is, even though his dad and mom managed to protect the lives of many, the last thing they were thinking of before they closed their eyes were, I wasn't able to help M.O. Sect grow and spread its reputation. I am ashamed. This is all because of him. Ghost Mountain Valley, their stronghold is under that lake. In two days' time, we will be going in. Yes. Night before Dong Ji. Humph, she's still as slutty as ever. I'm sure she's not even wearing anything under that robe. Who would have thought that she managed to acquire the inheritance from the Forbidden Land? While us demonic cultivators' inheritance is a double-edged sword. If you can control it, then it'll turn into a formidable strength. But once it's not suppressed, it's death. Perhaps it's also because of this that every single messenger becomes increasingly wild, revealing their natural instincts. Do you want to take a look? More of it? Lord Messenger. It's not like it's really impossible if you want to see it. Lord Messenger. This lowly one knows his faults now. It seems like you have digested the droplet of dragon's blood quite well. You've learned to be afraid of the strong. All I have for Lord Messenger is admiration and respect. There is absolutely no hint of being impolite. Even if you really have that though, as long as I'm in a good mood, I don't mind actually servicing you a little. This lowly one would never think of that. Get up already. Take care of this gathering this time, and maybe you'll get what you need in return. My lackeys should not be weak trash. Yes. My cultivation has recovered after consuming that half droplet of the dragon blood. Yet my cut-off arm still won't regenerate. It's all that pair of shitty couple's fault. If your arm can be regenerated soon, what would you do? Of course it's to finish off what I couldn't years ago. M.O. Sect, they're bound to be destroyed by me. But I've heard that M.O. Sect's Luchauga has been doing miraculous deeds. 
Plus he is also supported by the sword sex higher ups. So what? I have more than enough tricks to kill them without them realizing it. No, that's not right. Killing them off so silently would be too nice to them. I want to eat his younger sister right in front of Lu Chauga. HM, that does fit your style well. That place is the entrance of this time's gathering. Please let me go. I have a child in my stomach. Please don't kill me. We're begging you. Please let us go. These are the food supplies for this time's gathering. There's all sorts of tastes. Even the ones you like best, young girls under the age of 10. While I like that child within the pregnant lady's stomach. Thank you, Lord Messenger. Not enough money, Lessel, too. That pretty lady is back again. She brought a snake and a man here this time, too. That's right. This is one of the new players. But what kind of plot is this? I didn't play for two days and suddenly I'm in jail? I was captured by a beautiful lady then, so I thought there's a chance of this game had some 18 plus development and got so excited. I wasn't expecting to be in jail for the next few days instead. But with such a pretty girl, it's fine to be in jail, I guess. Though recently, there's more and more people in jail. The pretty lady's gaze is as if she's looking at a pig pens. I can't stand it. Save me. There's a pretty demon lady who wants to eat me. Someone send help. There's a pretty demon lady ready to be taken down. Is there anyone who wants to form a group to take down a pretty demon lady? I've already posted so much news in the forum, which have gotten quite some replies too. Where? Where's the pretty lady? I'm coming. I'll attack. I'm great at this. Eat you? Stop it. Let her eat me instead. Scram, all of you. Hurry up and send the location. I'll come over right away. But I'm unable to send out the location. Location failed to be shared. But it's alright too, I guess. It's nothing bad to be eaten by a beautiful lady. I still have revival coins so she can keep on eating me if she wants to. But the question now is... It's fine if you want to feast on people, but why are you inviting others too? I'm begging you. Please let go of my grandchild. If you want to eat, just eat me. They are really afraid? As a player, he's unable to understand the realistic emotions in this world. Sobs, sobs. Why am I the one who was caught? I haven't gotten married yet. I don't want to die. I suffered my whole life, yet I can't even die in peace now. They are truly afraid. Shut it. Your flesh is dirty. I don't like eating it. I only like eating the flesh of young girls because it's fresh and supple. I have to record all of these and post them on the forum. Perhaps then other players can find some cultivators to help. This is a demon cultivator? Can someone care about this? Fuck. Is no one giving a shit about this? Close up of the legendary great demon cultivator. Help! I've been captured. TT but. This demon cultivator is too heartless. Damn it, this bastard is sick. We're waiting for a great cultivator to slay him. He has to die. He has to, for eating young girls like that. Yon brother, you woke up so early? We'll be quite busy later on. So I had to wake up early to cook your longevity noodles first. Our little Lizzie has grown a year older again. Thanks, brother. Brother, you seem to be in a good state today. Of course, rather than just good, I'm actually feeling hyped right now. Thanks to a new player's recording, I was able to clearly find out where they are now. Everyone, long time no see. I'm curious how many people you've eaten and how much stronger your cultivation has become. That's of course not as fast as the messenger. Lord messenger, you are naturally so beautiful, yet you seem to have gotten even more beautiful. We ate a few goddess-like beauties a few days ago, but now that we compare, it appears that Lord messenger is still far superior. 
Seeing all these demons, even with a few more players, I think they'll just be extra food. Danger level, fatal. These are all boss dialogues. How can we win? We'll really just be fodder. Since everyone's here, let's start our meal first. Slurp, there's my favorite old man. Stubborn meat, good to chew endlessly. Great, there's young women. I love eating fleshy young women. You lot can eat whatever you want except the child of that pregnant woman. That's mine. No. Don't come over, don't eat me, don't eat me. Everyone, don't be afraid. I'll go ahead and stuff them all full. So hurry up and run. I wonder if I can really handle it with my revival coins. Ha ha ha. Are you hearing yourself? Stuff us all? With just you? I'm someone who has eaten an entire village before. I don't like average men like you, since your taste will definitely be just as average. Humph. Although I am only level 2, I have the determination to bring down a boss too. I'll fight to the death. Ah. Uh, Back down. Leave the rest to this venerable one. Everyone here is in great luck. You will soon die at the hands of the Chosen One and be known to the entire Tianxian world. It's them. It's them. Chi Yao, you know them? I won't forget them even if I die. That shitty pair who ruined my future. It seems like their children are here to exact revenge. That man is just a mere second rank. Is he here to be extra food for us? That man has a good-looking appearance. You guys are not allowed to ruin his face later. I want to keep that look of his forever in my place. Get him. Fatal? My sword that was sealed away for ten years. It's time. A second rank killed a fourth rank beast. With just a reflection, his sword hasn't even been unsheathed yet. My demonic beast has been killed. The spiritual contract has been canceled. You have killed the three-headed demonic beast, gaining 270,000 experience points. You have killed the vicious poison demonic beast, gaining 220,000 experience points. You have killed the life-endangering spider demonic beast, gaining 180,000 experience points. You have killed the fire snake demonic beast, gaining 300,000 experience points. You have triggered Azrank mission. Destroy the purple moon gathering. Mission description, kill all of the demon cultivators here. Your reward will be evaluated based on the numbers of demon cultivators and beasts killed. A mission triggered. The more I kill, the better the reward. The strength of my sword after being sealed for so long exceeded my expectations. But it's quite obvious that even with one inch unsheathed, my energy bar will be sapped dry immediately, so. Level up 24, there's no need to be frugal at a time like this anymore. Hurry. Go and kill him. Before he gets stronger. He's breaking through during a battle. We have to stop him right here. It seems little Lizzie's cultivation has far exceeded my imagination too. Then, it's my turn now. The crude beasts have been cleared. Next. It's time for the beauties that can talk. Hurry up and watch this. Look at who I'm streaming this live for. T this is, that figure, he is. M.O. Sex Lu Chauga. That's so cool. Was sect leader Lu always this strong? I thought a ninth rank sect wasn't never this strong. Who would have thought? This group of despicable human-eating demons will finally be stopped today, it seems. I've truly missed my chance in life for not joining an M.O. sect. I'm truly blessed to have been accepted into M.O. sect. How dare you? I'll kill you for taking my precious baby's life. No, I want to eat him. Starting from his legs, let him see himself being swallowed whole with his own eyes. 
Now, it's time to send you on your way. Level up 25. Let me eat you. Even though there's such a huge rank gap, yet, he still killed them in one shot. What exactly is behind that sword? That too are the ringleaders of this gathering, right? The demon cultivator for us to exact revenge on end. The boss that once roamed Tian Xian world, the cheeky demon. Cheeky demon, even when three top guilds attacked her at the same time, two of the guilds were still wiped out. Boss cheeky demon, therefore, even though this is just a medium boss, she still became well known for beating two guilds on her own. However, the reason she got so much attention wasn't because of her strength, but something else. Capture those humans and pin them down. Yes. Oh no, they're coming over here. Trying to capture them as hostage against me? He. Come over here. Hostages. Brother, you just have to focus on the fight. I'll protect them. Did you guys see that? MO6 Elder Lu Dong Li is also so strong. So it seems Lu Chaoga isn't the only strong one from MO sect. Wow. What a strong younger sister. Her legs are so long too. Her strength and her chest are completely opposite to each other though. Is this the legendary lacking in the chest department, but stronger in strength? It seems we have to do it ourselves, my assistant. I couldn't wait anymore. I want to eat those too. Ruining my cultivation and opportunity, it's time for me to end MO sect. Dongli, protect them well. But also protect yourself. Yes. This one slash, I've held back for dozen of years. This slash, I've waited for dozen of years. With this slash, I'll enter the realm of great cultivators. You must be thoroughly killed. Not even your soul should be able to reincarnate ever again. Ha. Ha. I've decided. This sword will be called Not Too Late, Dad. Why that name? Because it means that no matter when and where, it will never be too late. Dad and Mom. Ha ha ha. All right. All right. Dad. Mom. It's never too late for a gentleman to exact his revenge, right? Brother, we've exacted revenge for our parents. Little Lee Z, quickly go and thoroughly destroy those demonic cultivators' bodies. I have a bad feeling about this. I've truly gone all out this time. I'm somewhat exhausted. It'll take a long time to recover. Got it, brother. What's going on exactly? Why is it? Why? Mission still ongoing. Why is the system still not calculating the rewards? And that it's still ongoing? Brother. Quick, come. What is it? Look. This is the spot where you killed that strongest female demon cultivator, yet her corpse is gone. Brother. Be careful. There's something below. Red spider lilies? It's the thing behind the back of that woman. I saw it while you two fought earlier on. Quickly shield them from it. They seem to be in a trance from it. Brother, what exactly is that? I don't know either. But it's giving me a feeling that it's much stronger than that woman. Brother, T this is. The ancient beast, the red owl. Ancient beast, the red owl. Ancient Beast? I remember that this boss wasn't triggered after killing that woman in my past life, though. It seems things are progressing differently. Brother, this guy, it's in 5th rank, 7th heavenly layer. No, it's now 5th rank, 8th heavenly layer. 5th rank fight heavenly layer. His strength is still going up. Fuck, what is that? Speechless, how can something be both cool and ugly while also being both cool and disgusting? The wings of these red spider lilies are really cool, but the middle eyeball is so disgusting. Excuse me, how is that the main point here? 
It's the fact that a monster appeared, and we'll get to see Lu Chao GE attack again. Won't there be any cause? Can't you tell Lu Chao GE is not doing well now? His skills must be on cool down. It's a monster. A crazy strong one. Sect leader Lu can definitely bring it down. Do you have the confidence? No, but I have confidence I can delay it, so bring the survivors out first, brother. Brother, I have the revival doll. I will be okay. Hurry up and leave. You definitely can't survive against it. What's going on? First rank month heavenly layer, it's still breaking through. It's now in fifth rank, ninth heavenly layer. If it's just a fifth rank, then that's bearable. Little Lizzy, bring them and leave first. The further, the better. Brother, this is not the time to. Level up 26, level up 27. Level up 28. Level up 29. Brother, why your rank? Level up 30, I've broken through to the great completion stage. Second rank, great completion. Brother, you. Are my words nothing to you anymore? Lou Donnelly? But brother, your not too late has already been unsheathed, now. Who told you it can only be unsheathed once? I'll live. And that beast will definitely die. Brother, to think he has already gotten this strong. Hurry up and leave. This next slash, I can't even control it. Everything around me will be obliterated. Brother. Leave. How heroic. This is what heroism is about. Damn son. 666, his is crazy. Leveling up with each step he takes. There can't be anyone else stronger. Lu Chauga will definitely slay that monster. I bet on it. If Lu Chauga can survive this, I'll definitely go to M.O. Sect. Go away. We at M.O. Sect won't want someone like you. Sect leader Lu will definitely win. What happened to the live stream? I want to see Sect leader Lu. Where's the live stream? Where is it? I want to see him. I want to see Sect Leader Lu. I want to see Sect Leader Lu. Sect Leader Lu. That one last slash. It must be stronger than the ones we've seen. How much stronger it would be? It must be mesmerizing. Let me go. Let me die with Sect Leader Lu. Let me die. Please let me die. Sigh. Where would I get another strong slash? I spent 6 million experience points to level up my sword intent and spiritual sword just to create that scene. Sword heart level 1 level up sword heart level 2 sword intent level 2 level up sword intent level 3. Huff huff, the demon cultivators and beasts here provided me 8 million experience points, so it wasn't too bad to spend it all. But this guy, I'm only level 30, no matter how much I level up I can't possibly kill a level 60. It's the water curtain array set up in Ant Ning's leaf boat tool. Although Ant Ning is really strong, this array can only last up to 5th rank. I'm afraid it won't last long. If I can't stall him for a bit, then Dong Li and the rest won't be able to escape. Jiang Xian Yan's Jade Array has also been triggered. Is he going to start? But I still have something up my sleeves. My very last one, call for help. Although I can do that, if I want to finish the mission and gain the experience points, then I must fight it to the end. That means, I must land one hit at least. Well then, where should I deal the damage? I only have one shot at this. Ching Zhou Drunken Fairy Pavilion. Drunken Fairy Pavilion is well known to have the best alcohol, drunken crab, and salmon. Having tried it today, it truly is extraordinary. Look over there. What a beautiful lady. Customer, here's the salmon you ordered. To think there is such beauty in this world. 
I heard the salmon here is famous, but I wonder, when compared to yours, which is better? It's not good as his. I have traveled for thousands of miles in Qingzhou, tasted hundreds of inn's foods, yet. Lu Chaoga's cooking skills aren't the best in the world, but it suited Jiang Xian Yan's taste the most. As they always say, even the best cooking in the world can't compete to a taste that fits you. Daoist friend. What's going on with me? Don't I usually only like drinking alone? But why is it that today, I miss the moments we drank together so much? It was said that M.O. Sex Sect leader, Lu Chao G.E., amazes every single person who sees him. His beauty and charisma know no bounds, but who knows if that is true or not. But what's known is that during his sword-asking session, he won against everyone with just himself. Plus he won so effortlessly too. His cultivation has improved greatly yet again. I have already listened to this story more than ten times, but why is it still so interesting to me? As if I never get tired listening to it. And that is all for Lu Chaoga's story. If everyone has any spare money, please do support me. If not, that's all right too. Thanks for listening. The guest is so generous. This old man thanks you. It's a great story, so you deserve the reward. I'll reward you even if you repeat it 100 times. What exactly am I doing? What's wrong with me? Looking the peach blossom mark that we had, I suddenly miss you a lot. He is in danger. Hurry. Go faster. He's in danger. The real reason why Jiang Xian Yin continued to linger in Qing Zhou, it's actually to find her true self. It's similar to when one throws out a coin, they more or less know the answer. The moment the peach blossom mark glowed, she already knew her answer. That must be its weakness. After all, it's a monster awakened from the body of that woman. It must be that face of hers. Such a seductive face, it would be a waste not to leave a mark on it. Normal attack comes with critical hit slowed sound. I'm going to rush in using the first generation sword sex sword sovereigns techniques and finish this. This mere blast won't be able to kill this venerable one. It's time. Ah. Ranking up mission has been completed. Ah. It's getting closer. Even betting my revival coin, I will definitely slash you once more. Daoist. Friend Jiang? In this very moment, Jin Xian Yin finally understood. She saw every life in the world as the same, all except for this. Wait for me for 10 seconds. 10 seconds, huh? 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 Nine. Ten. She's much stronger than I expected. This is going to be troublesome. It would be embarrassing if I failed to outperform her at a crucial time in the future. Hurry. The remaining spiritual energy wave is coming. Daoist Jiang, you. Be careful. This is I I It's the monster's soul Aren't the souls of beasts usually most fragile Why is it still so strong This is bad I cultivate the martial Tao Towards a spiritual soul I can't Sword heart Daoist friend Quickly grab that thing Are you okay why did you force yourself just now? 
If it's someone else, I wouldn't have done it. But it's you. W. We'd better find a place to treat your injuries, yes. I can't identify what this is. Do you want this? Yeah. There seems to be some secrets on it. I want to investigate it. If I can't see through it, at least that little ghost back home can, right? Then keep it well. This has no use for me anyways. Thank you. There is no need for such courtesy between us. I understand. Daoist friend Lu, what exactly happened here? In addition, who made this sword mark here? Me. Even myself, I might be unable to handle this slash. Indeed, not many people in the fifth rank can handle it. But Daoist friend Jiang surely can. Did you unsheath your sword? I kept it sheathed for ten years just for this one slash, all for this day. I have finally killed my nemesis, who killed my parents. As for the Red Owl's appearance, it was entirely unexpected. So the reason he refused to unsheath his sword for ten years was for his parents, yet I don't know how I can comfort him. Daoist friend, there's a cave up front there. Will that place do for treating your injuries? Sure. Daoist friend, try sitting down first. I'll treat your wounds. Then, I'll have to trouble you. The wounds on his body are much more serious than I thought. Although that slash was strong after ten years, it was also extremely taking a toll on his body. If he could have called upon me earlier, then this wouldn't have happened, but if he did that, then he would no longer be himself. System, mission completed. Completed the mission Purple Moon Gathering. Assessing mission completion. 101% completion rate. Triggered special rewards. 101% completion rate. As expected of me, Lu Chauga. First reward, 3500000 experience points. Killing the Red Owl only gave 300,000 experience, including the rest of each of the demon cultivators and beasts. After deducting the experience I had to spend, I still have 500,000 experience points left. I only need 30,000 experience points to level up from 30 to 31. I can course through easily for some time now. Special Reward, Purple Moon Altar Purple Moon Altar, hint, it's advisable to form a team after level 50 before heading there. Special Reward, the Special Reward is a location? Purple Moon Altar? Is it a whole new area to explore? Is it that intense if one needs to be level 50 and above? Then for a chosen one like me, won't it be just fine to go there alone after level 50? Alright. This venerable one has decided to head there alone and solo grind it. You have completed the third rank leveling up mission orange rank. Would you like to receive your rewards? It's here. The mission I gave my all to finish by landing a slash on the red owl. It gave me a spiritual awakening voucher at level 10. A copying voucher at level 20. What about level 30? Sword intent level up voucher can only be used at your current level. It's the sword intent voucher. I already had my sword intent in level 3 now. If I go up to level 4 with this, I would save 8 million experience points. Wahahaha, I'm rich, I'm rich. This is truly a blessing. His spiritual flow is normal, there's no issue. Sadly my swordsmanship talent is at 3 points, so my sword intent can't be leveled up just yet. When M.O. Sect reaches the 8th rank and I gain more swordsmanship talent, then I will be able to use it. I just have to suppress myself to this level for now. Oh no, why did he wake up so suddenly? Daoist friend Jiang, what you are? I saw you twitching, so I wanted to check your pulse for a bit. Would you believe me? Then I'm sorry to have troubled you. To think he trusts me that much, even when I had his pulse, he's letting his guard down, what a weird feeling, even on Chun Chiu Mountain, no one trusted me to this extent. If so, I can only do my best to heal his wounds. 
Meanwhile, this person is currently treating a half-step sixth rank cultivator as some kind of healing nurse. Having a half-step sixth rank cultivator to nurse me is a dream that not many can achieve in their entire lifetime. Furthermore, with that costume, it would truly be the best. Daoist friend Lu, all the herb medicine has started working and your pulse is normal now. You may open your eyes now. Thank you. I have recovered two-thirds of my blood and overall, I feel significantly less weak than before. I have truly owed you a big debt. You saved my life and also healed my wounds too. If going with how novels usually are. If the life savior is ugly, then he, she can only repay their savior in the next life. But for someone like you, I suppose I can only offer my body. You're starting to spout nonsense again. Ha ha ha. Although his way of speaking is weird, he is still much more interesting than everyone else around me. That's... Is she looking at this? Thanks to the jade plate you have gifted me, I managed to survive until you appear. But unfortunately, after what happened, it has lost its effectiveness as a result of what happened. Not only did the calming effect fade, but it also developed cracks. With how smart he is, he must understand what that peace character means. Why did I do this again? Since it is no longer usable, you can return it to me. How can I do that? There's no such thing as taking back a gift you've gifted to someone, right? Furthermore, I've grown attached to wearing it. Shocking. Not only can Lu Chaoga can do such powerful slash once, but he can do it twice, scary. Lu Chaoga and the beautiful female demon cultivator did that. Terrifying. MO Sex 1 slash was unparalleled. I have no regrets entering MO Sect. Never. The story between MO Sect and the beautiful female live streamer, while Lu Chaoga's relationship progressed at lightning speed with her, he also triggered something in Tian Xian World's forum. To cool. Awesome. It's him, it's him. Nice. The Chosen One. Look, it really is the chosen one. M.O. sect is truly incredible. They are the strongest among all sects. Amazing. How smooth. Although I didn't watch till the end, sect leader Lu must still be alive. How great. So dazzling. Pretty cool. How can he die if he's the chosen one? Cool. If he died, won't the game just end? Start working those little brains of yours. He must be somewhere doing great things now. Don't think just because M.O. Sect is a ninth rank sect that we are not great. He's so strong. Amazing. M.O. Sect will definitely become a great sect one day. Awesome. Impressive. Cool. Thank you all for your faith in me. But regardless, such a wave of popularity will undoubtedly benefit M.O. Sect. She went out to buy medicine when the sun wasn't even out yet. It seems like she really will become a busy bee of a little wife in the future. Although spending the days where it's just the two of us are great, I have to return to M.O. Sect as soon as possible. Go to Dong Li and tell her I am well. Dong Li, the flying sword is coming. Looking at the time, she should be back soon, right? Quick. These are the medicine pills I got you. Take them. T thank you. You seem to be in a rush lately, Daoist friend. The icy beauty isn't so icy anymore. Don't thank me. Just eat it quickly. It'll help in recovering your wounds. I understand. Once a master, forever as my wife. I shouldn't take it to heart too much. Daoist friend, I am thinking of going back to my sect. He's leaving. Do you want to go back with me? Yes, sure. Speaking of which, you must have made some kind of breakthrough in the fight this time, right? Yes. I've gained newfound understanding that has helped me move my stagnate state at 5th rank. I'm now half a step further to 6th rank. The truth is, the understanding I gained wasn't from the fight. But because of the peach blossom mark, because of you, helping me realize my true feelings. Then I must congratulate you. Since you are about to break through, I have a suggestion. 
What is it? Do you want to do your secluded cultivation at M.O. Sect? A. Eh? T. That's a good suggestion. M.O. Sect is a quiet and stable place, perfect for S. Secluded cultivation. He's inviting me. He's inviting me to his home. If you're willing, I can personally cook to thank you as well for saving my life. A. Eh, all right then, I shall be in your care for a while. No, didn't he say that he'll repay me with his body, but now it's changed to cooking as a repayment. Wait, why am I thinking about these strange thoughts? What are you thinking about? Nothing much. Do you have anything you'd like to eat? Anything's fine. Really? Last time, I couldn't swallow more than a bite of the dish I bought. It could be the mandarin fish dish. She's acting a little different in front of me now. Somehow she seems a little more willful to me. Dan Ching Mountain M.O. Sect. Guys, this is my 250th time trying to pass this. This time I'll definitely make it. I'll bet my fortune on it. Let's go. Awa, uh, I failed. Big pendulum level. You won't get me, you won't get me. Flying bamboo arrow level. Ouch, ouch, that hurts. Damn it, shit. Is this really a level that humans can get through? Wooden hammer level, I.O., I.O. My brain is going to burst. Are these all people who want to become M.O. Sect's disciple? Yes. They all want to join M.O. Sect. This has been going on for quite a while now. Even Chun Chiu Mountain, one of the four great holy lands, would consider this number of disciples a huge increase. Besides, these levels, why are they different from the normal examinations of other sects? Other sects place more emphasis on a person's core bone, but M.O. sect prioritizes their reflex time, normal sex low-level applicant, comprehension, core bone, perseverance, talent, M.O. sex low-level applicant, reflex time, combat awareness, ability to resist blows. If their core bones aren't good, what's the point of having a great reflex? But, he must be right. Brother. Senior Jiang. Brother. Is S. She trying to hug him? Huh? No need to worry. Daoist friend Jiang came in time and helped me kill the red owl. So I'm fine. That was close. Even though I know it's his sister, why do I feel kind of angry when I saw them about to hug? Sigh, how strange. Am I mad? Why should I be mad? Thank you, Sister Jiang, for helping. Thank you, Senior Jiang, for helping. She must be feeling a little overwhelmed by this scene. After all, she has rarely received such thanks from people. All right, all right. Go back to the main hall first. Brother, I have so many questions I want to ask you. Sect leader, me too, sect leader, can you still cook us dinner? Just as Lu Chaoge returned to M.O. Sect, the news of Never Too Late being unsheathed was spread throughout Qing Zhou. Did you guys hear? M.O. Sect's Lu Chaoge's sword was unsheathed. It is said that the moment he unsheathed his sword, he split open the Ghost Mountain Valley and killed many demonic cultivators. Everyone is talking about it lately. If that's true, then he has certainly brought glory to a sword sex. If it's just a mere second-rank cultivator unsheathing his sealed sword, that wouldn't be considered big news in Qing Zhou. But rumor has it that the demonic cultivators he killed were rank 4 and above. If that's true, then the master of this Lu Chaoge is probably the senior who ranks third among the legendary four swordsmen. That seems very possible. After all, their story and background are too similar. Junior Brother Chen, let's go. We'll be heading to the Demon Ghost Valley. Senior Brother Yu Yu's hand is shaking. H has it finally been unsheathed? Ten years. Senior Brother Lu sealed his sword for ten whole years. Senior Brother Yu Yu, is sect leader Lu's sword really that strong when unsheathed, just as the rumors say? I'm not sure. But we'll find out when we get there. But I believe it must have been extraordinary. This slash sure was really sharp. What a strong killing intent. My junior brother told me that this young man awakened his sword intent at third rank. 
when he was in second rank, his sword intent rose to the second level under guidance. If that is really true, then this slash has certainly reached the second level of sword intent. No wonder Junior Brother was so happy and wanted to take him in as a disciple. This child is truly outstanding. But that's all he is. Huh? That's... Sword Intent, This Strand This slash of his does not have the might of a sword sealed for ten years, but it has a determination that ignores everything else and is meant to be unstoppable. His heart's nature is not bad. Wait. This, it contains the third level of sword level in it? He's just one step away from reaching the third rank. Yet his sword intent has already reached the third level. If he were born a hundred years earlier, how great would that be? You, you, you sure are lucky. To have someone to accompany you and motivate you to become better. The path of swordsmanship is much more meaningful like that. Unfortunately, I wasn't as lucky. Is senior brother looking down at me? Oh, I have junior brother. He's not bad. But if he saw this sight right now, Senior Brother, you're wrong again. You're extremely wrong. Absolutely, extremely, really wrong. Ha ha ha. Ugh. Speaking of Junior Brother, he once said that Lu Chowger refused to be his disciple because he already has a master. And that one slash of his that he spent ten years preparing. It somehow resembled Senior Luo's. It's been so long since I visited him. I should go and drop by one of these days. An hour later, Senior Brother Yu Yu, look. I can see it already. T this, even a great cultivator can't unleash such a slash. How strong. This slash, you can really say that it shook the world. But when can I ever receive this slash and resist it? Little Yu Yu, you're still far from that. Uncle G. These disciples greet you. Little you, you, even if you had reached fifth rank, you still wouldn't be able to resist this slash. Even being in the fifth rank, I still can't. Huh? Something feels off there. Let me go and take a look. Uncle G, did you discover anything? Ha ha ha. Sword intent at the third level. Sword intent at the third level. Ha ha ha. To think that Brat broke through on the spot and reached the third level of sword intent. Where is my senior brother? Where is he? Ha ha ha. Senior brother Yu Yu, did the vice leader mean that sect leader Lu has already reached the third level of sword intent? I believe so. Even though senior brother Chowga only formed his sword intent a few days before I did, but now, I am so far behind in this aspect. Then, are we still going to hide his identity as the mysterious senior brother? We cannot do that anymore. Once Uncle G returns to the sect, senior brother Chowga's name will be known throughout the sword sect. You, you. You must train your swordsmanship skills. Your swordsmanship skills. You must train your swordsmanship skills. Must train your swordsmanship skills. Must train your swordsmanship skills. I must train my swordsmanship skills to chase after senior brother Chowga. I have to. Senior brother, it's time for you to come out and admit your mistakes. Sword sect. Senior brother G, what's going on? My half-disciple has unleashed a great slash that surpasses even great cultivators. Even though he's only in great completion of second rank, he has even reached the third level of sword intent. A second rank surpassing great cultivators? He achieved the third level of sword intent even though he's only in the second rank? This, this level of talent is even greater than senior brother Yu Yu. T that disciple of yours, who is he? Is he in our sect? No, he isn't. He's the sect leader of M.O. Sect, Lu Chowga. M.O. Sect, that's one of the sects in the lower hundred sects. I think... I don't remember them at all, Lu Chowga. Where have I heard this name before? Oh, Chowga. You're scaring your aunt Ning out of nowhere again. 
I'm sure you're both proud when you're up there watching over them, aren't you? These two children have suffered a lot in the past few years. Nyo sure looks strong. I'm sure he's stronger in bed. Bullshit. Your person has not looked bad either. I think looks are more important though. That's the department they're lacking in. This is where Senior Luo is hiding. Feels like it'd be more respectful if I walked to where he's staying. Whoa, what a handsome and dignified look handsome. Where? Whoa, he sure looks fine. I'm sure a night with him would be great. Sir, where are you from? Where do you plan to stay tonight? I have a spare room, you know. Sir, don't listen to her. My beds are softer and bigger. I'm here to visit someone, so please stop following me. Ah, uh, all right then. I'll be waiting for you here. Yeah, me too. Forget it all. Wait, why are we here? Where's our clothes? Ah, uh, it's still at the riverside. Senior Luo. Come in. Find yourself a place to sit. I don't have tea. Just help yourself. The third of the four sword gods Luo Hashan. Senior Luo. Senior Luo, this is. I'm disabled. I need someone to do the work for me. You haven't changed, Senior Luo. You still don't use your spiritual energy, and you're still hell-bent on becoming an average citizen. So why did you seal up the spiritual energy of a young man as well? That young man is at the peak of the first rank, but seems like his spiritual energy has been sealed for at least a year. What are you staring at? Trying to slack off again? Pour the water into the vase and go get another bucket of water from the well. Senior Luo, the kid's body does seem a bit special. I saved him out of pure coincidence or fate. The kid wasn't born with enough chi, and his body was filled with yin chi. So, why have you come? I overstepped myself. Recently, an interesting young man appeared in Qingzhou. During the night of winter solstice, he swung his sword. The sword looks a bit similar to your sword. Hmm? Go on, tell me more. The sword sovereign told Luo Hashan everything he knew, even the details, a ten-year swing. It's true that he has a good nature. His sword is definitely different from mine. From what you told me, there's too much killing intent within the swing. Though it's true that the swing turned out very similar to mine, despite our differences. Precisely so. That's why I'm so curious as to where he learned those sword techniques. You can tell Ji Chang Kong about that kid now. I'm not his secret master. Damn it. You useless clumsy ass. From what you told me, if this Lu Chava kid really did reach the third level of sword intent while being at the second rank, and he's able to hide a sword for ten years, then he really does seem suitable for what's been passed down to us. If I met him at an earlier age, before he broke through the first rank, I would have taken him as a disciple. From the way he acted, seems like this young man is Senior Luo's disciple right now. If he actually is Senior Luo's disciple, that would explain the sealed rank. After all, Senior Luo is a full ranker. Luo Hashan, the third of the four sword gods. A position higher than the sect leader of the sword sect, Li Suifong. All of the other three sword gods are at the eighth rank. Luo Hashan alone sits at the peak of the sixth rank. But if you asked me to name a swordsman I envy, Senior Luo would be the only one. If he were to pull out his life sword, then the strength of that sword would instantly reach that of the peak of the eighth rank. Not only that, each of his swords would be stronger than the last. And since he's already pulled out nine swords, for the remainder of his life, he can only pull out one more. Maybe, that sword can achieve the legendary ninth rank. The ninth rank that I'll never know. You said that Lu Chaoga isn't a disciple of the sword sect? And that he's already the leader of a sect at such a young age? Which sect is he from? I'll see if it's related to my predecessors. It's the MO sect of the Qinglong Zhou area. 
The MO sect? Is that the same as the MO sect you're from? The MO sect of Qin Longzhou? So he's the sect leader you keep buzzing about? The one that's also your master brother? Achu. Achu. Damn it, who's talking about me? Ah, uh, right. The names of the rest of Dong Li's disciples are still clearly listed down in the system. That means they're safe and sound. So why are they not coming back? Yang Shu, especially this pretty boy. He's not getting bullied out there, right? It's true that Lu Chaoga is my master brother. If this kid, Yang Shu's master brother, is Lu Chaoga, then his master must be Lu Chaoga's sister, Lu Dongli, and Ji Chang Kong took in Dongli as a disciple. This is too messy. Senior Luo, when we talk in the future, you should call me Master Li, and I'll call you Senior Luo. How's that? I should just use my tenth sword on that damn Li bastard. Oh no, Senior Luo is going to hone in on him now. Move. Bring me two more buckets of water. Yes. H.M.? This kid's too weak. I should help him out. Huh? That senior is helping me. Seems like he's just like Master Brother. He's strong and kind. Master Brother is more amazing now. I wonder how Master and the M.O. Sect is doing. Hey, girly. How many more buckets of water do you need to carry? Come on, stay the night with me, and I'll carry that bucket for you. Look at those luscious lips and those white teeth. Wanna be my wife? Seems like Master Brother is the only one in the world that wouldn't humiliate me. An immortal lives here. Clean this place up once every three months. I'm getting old now, so I'll leave this place to you guys from now on. Do all three of us get to stay? Only one gets to. And it'll be the strongest among you. As long as I clean the house properly, maybe I'll get chosen by him. Maybe I'll even get to become his disciple. The strongest, that can't be me. Gotta rub, rub, rub. I'm sure he can recognize my effort. Ah, there's a dead mouse. It stinks. Like it's been dead for a few days already. Right, my brothers were always afraid of things like that. Mom was always the one that dealt with it. This time, it can't be my turn, right? I didn't think there'd be things like these even in a cultivator's house. It smells. I think we have to clean it up. I don't want to. You do it. You thought I'd do? I don't even want to touch that. This is the house of a cultivator after all. If we left the mouse to continue to stink, I'm sure he won't feel very good about it. I'll do it. You? Are you up for it? I, I can do it. I, I can do it. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Yang Shu, hold it in. You can't cry. You're a man. I'll leave all the future work in this yard up to you now, little man. That was the first time someone called me a man. And now, the last dish, Master Brothers Mandarin Fish. Heave ho. His work is as enchanting as ever. Let's eat, let's eat. I'll even lick the plate clean today. You can't lick senior brother's plate. His plate is mine today. Silence. Daoist Jiang, why don't you have the first taste to see if this dish fits your taste? Sure. Mmm. This familiar splendid taste, feeling, and texture. It tastes good. Xiao Qiu's stomach is hungry. Sect leader, senior uncle, let me try the food too to see if it fits my taste. Eat. Sect leader's red braised pork is still the best. This Chinese perch tastes amazing. I can't take this any longer. I'll have ten bowls of rice tonight. After dinner, Jiang Xinyan continued her cultivation in seclusion, but there were other things that were happening whilst under the cover of the night. Lu Donglei's bamboo house. Brother, shall we begin? Yes. The moon is high in the sky. It's time. Then let's count the treasures that we've got from eradicating the purple moon's meeting place. 
All of these storage rings and storage bags definitely have many treasures from the demonic cultivators in them. After counting this loot, you will truly be a rich woman. That's not true. Brothers recruited so many external disciples, I'm sure we'll have to spend a lot. You should be the one calculating this, shouldn't you? I really hate calculating all our finances. Even in my previous life, I never deliberately remembered the amount of money I had in my bank card. It was always far too much to even count. This is. What's wrong, brother? It's the soul jade's fragment. And a big piece of it, too. It's enough to help Hei Ting to break through to the second stage. But is it really fine for us to let Hei Ting absorb something like this? At least, for now, it's safe. I'll keep watch over him when he absorbs it. If there are any problems, I'll protect him. Hei Ting's background is a mystery. Who knows if we'll still be able to see that black ocean when he absorbs the fragment of the soul jade this time. Hei Ting and the Sword of the King of Death are definitely related to each other. I hope that by letting him break through to the next realm this time, we'll be able to gain some information. Oh right. Where's Hei Ting? The brat really has no presence, so I don't even know where he is. I'll use my mind's eye to find him then. You little brat, you made me run around trying to find you. Start cultivating quickly. I have found a soul jade for you. This brat has so little presence that there's almost none. It's so little to the point that I nearly didn't find him through my mind's eye. Master found this specially for me. What? Are you going to take this and seclude yourself somewhere to cultivate? There's no need to hide. I'll set up a protective array for you, so just cultivate right here. I'm your master, so why are you being so courteous to me for? Just sit down and cultivate. Calm your heart down. First rank, 8th level first rank, ninth level. Good boy. His absorbency rate is pretty high. First rank, peak he's at the peak of the first rank. That means he's reached level 20 and requires some special medicine to help him break through to the next stage, but the soul jade's energy has yet to be absorbed fully by him. This looks like, is he relying on the soul jade to break through to the next rank? Is this brat really going to create a miracle? His shadow is starting to spread again. I'm right here. Second rank. You have completed the second stage of the sex main mission strength in MO Sect. MO Sect has reached all requirements for leveling up. Do you wish to level up your sect? It's finally here. Yes. The second reason as to why I helped M.O. Ting break through to the next stage was because I needed to complete the mission to level up the sect. In order to do so, there needs to be three cultivators above the second rank in the sect. Eighth rank sect. Finally, I can't believe we've leveled up. The skies have cleared. The skies have cleared. We've finally leveled up. Mom. Is this what true light is? We can stop worrying about people mocking us for being a 9th rank sect. Since we've managed to raise our rank to an 8th rank sect, that means we'll be able to become a 1st rank sect in the future. Sect Leader Lu, keep up the good work. Let's go up to the 1st rank. Level up to the 1st rank. This feels exactly like studying hard for an exams and getting a score of 985. Hee hee hee. Didn't our sect level up due to having completed a huge sect mission? Shall we really do it? Yes. Not bad. Now my sword aura can finally be leveled up once more. You have completed the main mission. Sword aura talent X1 and 200000 experience has been awarded. Do you wish to use the sword intent leveling voucher? Yes, no. If I choose to level up now, I'm afraid that I will cause quite a huge commotion. I'll wait for a little longer. 
If someone finds out that Hey Ting is a little different from the others, that won't be good. It's great to be talented and cool, but one ought to be more clever about it. Since I can't level up now, I'll take a look at other things. Like for instance, how much more do we have to do in order for MO Sect to be upgraded into a 7th rank sect? Sect mission the third set, the main sect mission, strengthening the MO Sect needs to fulfill these four criteria in order to increase its rank to a 7th rank sect. Criteria 1, there must be one cultivator at the 4th rank or two peat 3rd rank cultivators. Completed, criteria 2, 5 cultivators at 3rd rank and above 1 5th. Criteria 3, sex disciples must be over 300 completed. Criteria 4, the sex reputation must be at least 5,000. Completed. Damn, we've already completed 3 out of 4 criteria? The best thing is, we've already got a cultivator that's above the 4th stage. My goodness, it must be her. How much is that girl hiding from me? Currently, I'm only at the peak of the second stage. As long as I break through to the next realm, then the second condition will be 2 out of 5. After that, I'll have to encourage our disciples to cultivate more. Second rank. 1 ST level, second rank. Second level, second stage, third realm, he's still breaking through? This brat breaks through so many levels with the help of items, did he take an overpowered genre script that makes him the protagonist of the story? That makes sense, considering that his master is the Heaven's Chosen, and aren't the disciples of a Heaven's Chosen is usually that of an overpowered male protagonist? This kid's luck is really good. He doesn't even need to do anything, and op items instantly come to him. Do you feel any discomfort? The voice that you heard whilst being sealed in ice, did you hear it this time round? That's good. Go and have a good rest. I still have other things to do. Um, are you trying to ask if you can help in any way? You don't need to help for this. My disciple has broken through to the second rank already. So as your master, it's time that I break through to the next realm too. Third rank, first level. Master has broken through to the third rank. I'm not done yet. I've used that sword intent leveling up coupon as well whilst breaking through. Sword intent level 3 level up sword intent level 4. Master's sword intent has reached the fourth level. W what is this? What's happening now? Is it going to rain swords? Don't be stupid. That's clearly a unique vision. What are you even talking about? Damn, could it be that the sect leader Lu doing something? It looks amazing. We should record it down. It'll definitely go viral if we post it online. That's right. Quick. Let's record it. It's definitely a unique visage that was triggered by sect leader Lu. Our MO sect is going to go viral once again. Did Brother Breakthrough once again? This doesn't seem like a vision for a breakthrough to the next realm. I've never seen such a large vision before either. He's getting stronger and stronger. But even if I were to break through to the sixth stage, I wouldn't be able to cause such a huge commotion. Senior Gu Xu's words are slowly coming true right before my very eyes. Congratulations, Daoist Lu. Leveling up a third level sword intent to that of a fourth level sword intent, I'm the first person to have done that, right? HM? You're trying to get out of the scabbard? Alright then, I'll let you have your way. Come out from the scabbard then. The creation of the sky and earth gathering in heavenly splendor, and the yin and yang determines the light and shade. Look at the MO sect. There's a vision at the MO sect. None in our sect would even be able to hold off that single sword strike just now. It would only be possible if the founder of our sect were to suddenly revive. Then does that mean that if we were to properly cultivate, we'll eventually reach that standard as well? If our founder can do it, then so can we. The Golden Degung sect is a strong sect after all. 
These stupid brats, our founder was a heaven's chosen to begin with, and all of you are merely just the remnants that the other big sect whose talents weren't enough for them to want. How can you live up to the standard of the founder? Sigh. I'll just let them continue living in their delusions. To think that back when I was younger, I was just like them, dreaming of the day that I'd be invincible. Mo Sex Lu Chowga is really getting stronger and stronger. If we don't form relationships with them right now, we'll never be able to in the future. Aren't they way better than us now? With the current standard of girls that we have now, he won't be willing to let us become his friends. So cool, for CGI, we still have to look at Sect Leader Lu. So Duang Duang Duang. This sword strike literally split the skies. What's splitting the skies? This is clearly him creating the sky and earth and gathering it in heavenly splendor and using the yin and yang to determine the light and shade. We're both the same age, so why are you so amazing? Also, what was the next line of that poem again? It's my heart expands to take in the layers of floating clouds. I look out far and wide and see birds on their homeward journey. Doesn't it have fit nicely here? Doesn't it feel like someone stepped on our face? What the hell are you talking about? This vision is clearly the last sentence of the poem. May I one day ascend to the absolute highest and look on from the top at all the tiny mountains. Based on this, that Chi Xiao was definitely killed by sect leader Lu. That's right. I agree. I really want to see sect leader Lu's abs. If I can touch them, that would be even better. Can you stop turning the chat into an NSFW chat? We're talking about how strong sect leader Lu is. Whilst the chat was exploding, right where Lu Chaoga was standing, Jiang Xian Yin and Lu Dongli had arrived as well, and the atmosphere between the two girls became a little strange. I don't know why, but recently, I've started being scared of seeing Daoist Lu's little sister. How strange. I don't know why, but seeing Sister Jiang makes me a little disdainful of her. Clearly she's the one that saved my older brother, so shouldn't I like her instead? You're both here. Brother, did you reach the fourth level of the sword intent? That's right. I had been a little inspired, and so I contemplated on things. Before I knew it, I had reached the fourth level. Daoist Lu, you've reached the third rank too? That's right. It was convenient, so I broke through to the next stage whilst breaking through to the next stage for my sword intent as well. A little inspiration? And he managed to break through to the fourth level of the sword intent? Convenient? He broke through to the next stage all because of convenience? Congratulations, sect leader, for breaking through. I'm very happy today, so I'll be adding two more dishes to the dinner table. Then I want to eat four bowls of rice to celebrate sect leader uncle breaking through to the next stage. Xiao Chiu really does what she says. If there's rice on the table, she'll really eat it. I'm here. Coming. I'm quite busy at the moment, so it took such a long time for me to seek you out again. Here, I've brought some purple moon badges for you. Whoa! There's so many. One, two, three, four. Since you've given me so many purple moon badges, how many sword techniques and skills do you want? HM? You'll give whatever amount I ask? What? I didn't hear what you said just now. Look at that classic act of trying to act stupid. Just give whatever you want. I need a basic sword skill, and if there are techniques or skills related to defense and footwork, that can work as well. Currently, there are so many players in the MO sect, so I need a lot of low-ranked skill books. A basic technique, huh? All right then. So many? Don't tell me that you've taken out all of your basic technique skill books. Is that a lot? This is nothing. I still have. Much, much more. Whoa. It's like what they say, to have someone old at home is like having a treasure trove. The old ones don't lie. So you'll take the purple moon badges in exchange for 200 basic technique skill books, right? It's a deal. It's a deal. Jackpot. All right, I'm leaving now. 
Hold on, I have something else. Take a look, see if you recognize it. Awoo, oh, do you know what this is? It died. That's not a fucking scrap of him, got it. Hold it in, it's just like a child. Well, one that's 10,000 years old, I guess. Hmm, I don't know what it is either, but it seems like something was drawn on using the refined blood of a monster. Though, the blood already lost its effects. There's a light smell of a soul that's been left behind, too. It'll probably disappear after a few more days. I got it from Yowie's back. Who would draw that thing with refined blood, then stick it on her back? Then she turned into a red owl. That means it wasn't stuck on, but that it was a parasite. What's this, a man-made monster? Or is it a resurrection of a past monster? If Purple Moon was capable of things like these, that'd be pretty groundbreaking. Almost as amazing as me. It's a shame that no new hints emerged even after I collected a bunch of Purple Moon badges. The system probably thinks I know too much as well. It's not giving me any hints. Though, good thing it gave me the coordinates to the Purple Moon altar. Could the altar be related to this paper? The system hints that I should be at least level 50 before I go there. Even if I go now, I'll probably. This month, are you going to do it as well? I know, the monthly ordeal of emptying myself out. Refined blood. Hey, hey. Just one drop. It's useless if you get other kinds of blood anyways. Good work. I'm satisfied now. You should get going now. You're looking a lot like a scumbag woman who's interested in nothing but my body. I feel like I've been emptied out. I'm finally back. I thought I'd die somewhere on the way and get picked up by some banshee passing by. I'll just sleep here for today. Go, go, go. Kill them. Come on, where's the hype? I'll give a little extra to those with a little more. Waho. That night, Lu Chowga dreamed of tidbits of the past that's almost been forgotten. He had a great night's sleep. The Pavilion of Secrets The Pavilion Master is reading up about the M.O. sect again. Lu Chowga caused a lot of commotions again. If I had known, I should have been more aggressive when I went to the M.O. sect. What if I actually managed to cause something to happen with him? I would have been a woman with a close connection to the genius that rattled the heaven and the earth. He is the real genius that's been pulling off all sorts of achievements one after another, after all. The sudden occurrence of resonance within the sky and the earth. A weird phenomena that covers an area of at least a hundred miles. I'm the hand of the heavens, and he's on the opposite side of the chessboard, causing weird phenomena like this. Is the sky and the earth causing a commotion for him? There's no way. It's impossible. I'm the true hand of the heavens. What does he amount to? But then the M.O. sect recently turned from a small sect with ten into a huge sect with thousands. And Lu Chowga's been breaking through levels after levels, and in lightning sword intent, that's not something a small sect can do. Lu Chowga, seems like I have to push my meeting with you ahead of schedule. After I complete the hint that the heavens provided me, I'll look for you myself. I'll never forget the things you did to me. You're the reason I'm blind in one eye. Apparently, Lu Chowga awakened the power of water. The power of water, that's really something. Xuanji. Yes? What a bad expression. Is he going to stir something up with Lu Chowga right at this moment? The fight of two tigers. One comes out injured. Doesn't that mean I could use the chance where Brother Lu is injured and warm him up, offer him a hug, some action, repeated climaxes? I need you to go out for a bit. Continue to collect information on the M.O. sect and Lu Chowga. Don't leave a single detail behind. Huh? You're not going to the M.O. sect? Are you judging the way I do things? I was wrong. I'll look into everything on earth related to the M.O. sect and Lu Chowga. I won't leave a single detail out. Humph. Do it again, and I won't let you off so easy next time. That annoying old man. If it weren't for the things you've done for me in the past, I would have betrayed the pavilion long ago. Sigh. 
I'll wait until the conflict between Lu Chauga and the old man, then I'll run towards Lu Chauga with the information and resources of the pavilion. Xuanji, killing the old man of the pavilion was all thanks to you. H. He'll do things with me that won't end with just a few days and a few nights, right? Lu Chauga, you might have plucked away pieces from the chessboard, but there's no way you'll take it all away. I'm already looking forward to my next chess pawn. Arg, that was a nice sleep. The sun's real high up already. Yawn. It's been a while since I peeked at the chat. I wonder what the characters of the world have been talking about. But who doesn't love a little lurking? Sky has everyone eaten yet? Earth I did. Dark I did. Yellow I did. Hmm, pretty standard. I'll keep scrolling. Sky has everyone eaten yet? Earth I did. Dark not yet, about to. Gonna eat something good. Yellow I did. Sky has everyone eaten yet? Earth I did. Dark I did. Yellow I did. Why do you characters of the world keep talking about food? Is food the only thing in your head? Go start a food channel. Dark you keep asking if we've eaten. Sky, aren't you sick of it? I'll say something interesting then. There we go, something interesting. Dark, have you guys heard about the new bee in Qingzhou with the most popularity and the most potential? Apparently, he reached the third level of sword intent at just the second rank. Sky, that's Lu Change of the MOSEC. I've heard of him before, he's talented indeed. Yellow, he's not bad. Earth, interesting, but why'd you bring him up, Dark? He, my name is the one chosen by the heavens has already spread far. But he can't have brought me up for nothing. Dark, it's because I'm on my way to Qingzhou to complete some errands for Master. If I have time. I want to duke it out with Dark this Lu Chauga. Sky, really? Earth, really? Yellow, really? This guy, he's gonna come knocking straight on my door. Dark, you'll know if I'm lying or not in just a few days. Dark, my master uncle, is in Qingzhou as well, and he hasn't come back to the sect in a long time. It's a good chance for me to look for my master uncle as well. Sky, I await your new. Earth, I await your new. Yellow, it's the same for me. You reach the end. Duke it out with me? Interesting. Hmm, constantly leeching off of the character of the world, you you eh, ain't it? It's time. To find someone new. But who could this dark be? Master Uncle left the sect for a long time, and they like to duke it out with people, so they can't be a pushover. Ah, it can't be the one at the Spring Autumn Mountain? The Master Uncle would be Jiang Xinyan, and the techniques of the Spring Autumn Mountain amplifies their desires. It fits. Hey brothers, take a look. That's the very crack that the M.O. sect sect leader carved out with his own sword. They say that this swing alone is enough to compare to the power of a small nuclear weapon. Jkun hell yeah. Bro, that angle of view is tiny. Great job, Jkun. For average people like us, that blade could put a clean cut through a whole crowd of us. Jkun, young beauty, hey, Jkun. You done? We agreed on five minutes per person here. You're going overtime. Exactly. You've been recording for five minutes and three seconds, so leave. Leave. Leave this instant. It's five minutes per person to record sect leader Lu's miracle act. We'll gang up on you if you don't follow the rules. Get that kid away. Yeah. Take him away. We can't let him hoard all the popularity. Hey brothers, I'm winging it. This will be a fun stream, it seems. Take a look at the Ghost Mountain Valley. What huge, round mountains. But then, there's a crack in the middle. As expected of sect leader Lu here. It truly takes the strength of a chosen one to leave such a trace on the world. My brothers, don't forget to follow. Remember, it's Chkun. Call me Kuin if you want. Signing out. Young beauty, hey guys, how are you doing? Ain't that something? What a powerful swing. The saintess of the spring autumn mountain, 
Pei Chan Chan, apart from Master Uncle Jiang, none of the fifth rank cultivators in our sect can take on that swing. Isn't it a bad idea to look for Lu Chaoge in the MO sect and to duke it out with him then? That was a pretty strong swing. But YSL's blush, Dior's perfume, and Chanel's lipstick, I want it all. But then, I spent all my money on the top brand Apple Spear maintenance wax. Seems like that trip to MO sect is a must now. We girls should treat ourselves better. I'll buy what I want. Spread it around. Let everyone know about the big thing I'm about to do. Flying Bird City. Whoa ho. Let it rain. Come on, rain some more. Cat City. Juju Prefecture, ha, spread it some more. The Spring Autumn Saintus, one of the four saints, challenges the sect leader of the MO sect, Lu Chaoga, to a fight. Huh? Really? Why is the Spring Autumn Saintus messing with sect leader Lu? Watch that mouth. It's a spar. Don't you know what a spar is? Seems like the Spring Autumn Saintus is looking to challenge Qingzhou's strongest new bee. One's a rising star of the sword, another is a Saintus of the spear. It's hard to say who'll win. Since it's hard to say, why don't we? Start a betting pool? You, sir, are a genius. Boss. I'm betting on the Spring Autumn Saintus. I'm betting on sect leader Lu. The people of Qingzhou gotta support each other. I put all of my life savings onto the Spring Autumn Saintus. The Saintus can cut with elegance. It's a sure win. Sorry about that, sect leader Lu. I'm gonna need you to go along with my little plan for now. Treat it as a favor for me from the MO sect. I won't forget this. Miss Luo Bing, you're looking more and more stunning each day. What are you here for today? Seems like I've been growing recently. The doo-doo is getting a bit small. I was wondering if there's any here. After learning that the young lord likes it big now, I made sure to massage them every night. Even though the results aren't obvious, but it still had some effect, the chances of the young lord liking me just went up a little more. He, he. You're in the right place, Miss Luo Bing. Here, let's head inside. We have all kinds. Double-banded ones, ones that hang around your neck, ones that stretch around your torso. There's also a new one that's so stunning it stops people in their tracks. I didn't know that there were so many kinds of dudas. That's the one. Everyone that's bought it before has some praises for it. If I really wore it, maybe I could stun the young lord too. Hey, is your leg okay? That's nothing, it's just a fracture. Now go to the betting pool. Quick. Help me bet ten bundles of coins on sect leader Lu. They're talking about the young lord? Miss Luo Bing, why'd you walk out? Come on, you can look for a little longer. A spar between the spring autumn saintus and sect leader Lu. I'm betting on sect leader Lu. Ha, huh, what an idiot. Sect leader Lu may be a prodigy, but that's the spring autumn saintus, you know? I'm betting on the saintus. You're not a real person of Qingzhou if you don't bet on sect leader Lu. Hey! We're betting money here, no guilt tripping. The Spring Autumn Saintus is looking to spar with the young lord? They even started betting on it? That's what's going on. I need to let the young lord know right away. Daoist Lu, did something good happen? Why do you say so? You're always so busy. Why would you come drink with me if it wasn't because something good happened? Ah, uh, she's mad at me for not spending more time with her. Looks like her betrayal of her masters is close. Young Lord, this is bad. H.M.? Young Lord, there's someone spreading this pamphlet around town. They're starting rumors and causing trouble. Ha, ha. As Senior Jiang, you're here too. The Spring Autumn Saintus Pei Chan Chien wants a spar with me? Hmm? I was going to use the killer brothel move and moan to improve the young lord's view on me, but I didn't think Senior Jiang was here. Too, that's embarrassing. Though, I think the young lord lost focus for a bit. Maybe I've already imprinted myself within his heart. If that's the case, it's fine even if it's embarrassing. That's it? 
the spring autumn Santis wants to spar with me? Why is that a big deal? Th that's not just it. People are starting betting pools left and right, including the casinos in neighboring cities. It's like the entirety of Qingzhou is betting on this spar. If you lost, then the entirety of Qingzhou would know about it. You think I'd lose? In Lu Bing's eyes, sect leader is the most amazing cultivator in the entire world. Even if the opponent is a sword master, I'm sure you'd win. But Lu Bing can't help but worry about sect leader. I'm sorry, that was rude of Lu Bing. His disciples sure are respectful to him, but why do I feel like this girl? Has some strange feelings towards him. I need to watch out for her. I can't let her get too close to him. What do you think? Bullshit. Even if she's was the disciple of a master saint, she shouldn't be messing around here in the M.O. sect. What if she actually came? I can't take it lightly then. How could she call it a spar? For seniors, you can only use words like seeking guidance. That's not a big deal. If she actually came, of course I'll give her a couple of pointers here and there. And now that there are betting pools, it'd be a shame to let all that money go to waste. My guess was right. She's dark. Maybe the identities of the four of them are already a known secret within themselves, and that's why she dares to act so flashy. Sigh, the amplified desires of that Pei Chan Chan is so weird. On the surface it seems like she loves money, but that's not it at all. It's the desire to buy, what a weird desire. How much should I bet on myself then? What a pain, I need to look for little Lee later as well. She's the one with access to the MO6 finances after all. Even though I have my own money as well, it's obvious I could use sect funds for a situation like this as well. Place your bet. I'm recording that down. No take backs allowed. Heh, looks like I'm going to be rich. Senior Yu Yu, the fish here is famous all around Qingzhou, you know? If it weren't for the mission this time, I'm not sure when I'll get the chance to try it out. Hey, did you hear? About how the spring autumn saintess Pei Chanchian challenged the sect leader of the MO sect, Lu Chaoga? A spar between Senior Lu and Pei Chanchian? Huh, sect leader Lu and Spring Autumn Saintus are going to fight? That's been spreading for a while now. Gambling houses all around Qingzhou have already set up betting pools. I myself bet 20 silvers on sect leader Lu. S. Senior, what's up with you? Is the fish not good? Pei Chanchian challenging Senior Lu? This can't be happening. Absolutely not. The only one that can challenge Senior Lu is me. Let's leave. Senior, where are we going? M.O. Sect. Now? There's still a lot of fish left. Enjoy that yourself then. Senior. Please wrap this up for takeaway. Senior Yu Yu, we have a mission to do, to change our route like this, I'm afraid. It's fine. If anything happens, I will take responsibility for it alone. Fine, but what are we going to do at M.O. Sect? Are we going to watch the battle between Sect Leader Lu and Pei Chanchian? No. Not watching, rumor has it that Pei Chanchian is very talented in the spear, that she's a prodigy of the century, and she's not below Senior Yu Yu whatsoever in terms of both physically and in terms of understanding. Ho ho, seems like the duel of the M.O. sect will get a lot more interesting. This isn't a battle I can interfere with, I'm just a spectator in this. Ah, that's some good fish. Hot. Info on Spring Autumn Saintus versus the sect leader of the M.O. S.E.C. After a few days, this matter is already the biggest thing going on within the Tianqian world. The entire forum is talking about it, and it goes without saying for the Qingzhou players. Even the people of Beijo have joined the conversation about the battle of the century. As both an influencer of the Tianqian world and an errant runner disciple of the M.O. sect, won't it be unforgivable if I don't even do anything to add to the hype? Foxy Lin, of course sect leader Lu will win. Witches should stay away from my man. The fox's little follower, is that actually Foxy Lin replying? The king of all passerbys, what, Lu Chaoga is your man? but not mine. 
I made a huge donation yesterday. A dirty old man that likes to get dirty, even if you use such explosive language, it still makes me think of your thin long legs and laces. I love being a simp, Foxy. I've liked you for a long time now. Can I add you on WeChat? Humph, a bunch of simps. So what if you gave a donation? He's the only one worthy for me. Download complete. As a disciple of the MO sect, I need to witness Chaga's moment of glory with my own eyes. We still can't enter the inner gates? I spent so much to get the best recording tool from the system, but how am I supposed to record anything if the gate won't even open? If sect leader Lu and Pei Chanchian really fought in there, then all that money will go in the drain. Yeah. As a disciple of the MO sect, if I can't even watch this fight, what sort of disciple am I? Does sect leader Lu even treat us as one of his own? Sigh. I did so many missions, but I haven't even seen sect leader Lu in the flesh yet. This can't go on. I can't let their morale continue to drop like this. We're disciples of the MO sect. How could they doubt Chauga, the very leader of the sect? Everyone. There's no way sect leader Lu will disappoint us on this. We'll all be able to witness the battle of the century. Where's your proof? Do you have a way to enter the inner gates? Aren't you trapped out here too, like the rest of us? You're in denial. Well, I, what do I do? They're not coming down. Everyone, take a look at this. T that's, sect leader Lu's impression of him. Lu Chauga's favorability plus five, he improved Lu Chauga's impression of him. I'm not dreaming, right? Your eyes are not mistaken. That's five whole points of appreciation from sect leader Lu himself. And it's mine. As a chosen disciple of the MO sect, how could you be out here doubting the sect leader himself? Aren't you ashamed? But, we're just. No matter what, we have to trust sect leader Lu. There's no way he'll forget about us. All hail sect leader Lu. He still needs someone else to fan the flames. These guys, I've already hyped the atmosphere up to this point, but why is no one shouting with me? Is it funny? Making things so awkward for me? All hail sect leader Lu. We'll witness the battle of the century together. All hail sect leader Lu. All hail sect leader Lu. All hail sect leader Lu. Hey, not bad. A nice errand boy for my man. Girl, not bad. You aren't aiming for our sect leader here now, are you? When the thousands of disciples of the MO sect were planning among themselves, Lu Chaga was panicking like a man outside of the delivery room. It's been so long, so why is nothing happening? This morning, I felt that something was happening to her rank, and that the spiritual energy of the atmosphere was rushing towards her room, but even after so long, she still hasn't broken through to the sixth rank, as one is training their body. The amount of battle power flowing through their body is high. It's common to have trouble with crossing a rank, but that also means it's very difficult to break through. In my previous life, she's never broken past the fifth rank. It's strange, but this time she is already on the verge of breaking through. Could this also be one of the butterfly effects of me coming to this world? But if she broke through to the sixth rank, then won't it be more difficult for me to get her to open up? It'll be bad if I can't get her to trust me during key moments. What if I raise up a rank myself? She did it? Look! The mountain peak of the MO sect was struck by lightning. Which bastard's making in a ham? Which fellow cultivator just broke through? What a strong tornado of spiritual energy. There's no way her clothes can handle it all. If I were to open the door and enter now, I might lose a resurrection coin to her embarrassment and anger. Then wouldn't that be the rumored pay to watch? One candle later. She's coming out. Thank you for protecting me during that time. Even in my past life, I've never seen Master dress like that. She really is the perfect embodiment of what I find the most attractive. Who cares about saving up on experience? Experience is used for leveling up. I want to level up and get through her defense. 
I want her to let her guard down around me. Don't worry about it. I did it out of my own volition. Is that so? Would you come drink with me? Until we're both drunk? It's my pleasure. I can drink a lot, so I'm afraid you'll have to spend a lot. Today, I'm about to make the most important decision of my life. My fate is tied to you now. After three rounds of drinking. Daoist Lu, don't be so reserved. You should drink more. Didn't you say it's cooler to drink quickly? All right, I will. Tonight's Master Jiang is really weird. It's almost as if she's intentionally trying to get herself drunk. Let's play something interesting. If it's heads, you drink. If it's tails, I will drink. How about it? Sure. You know, we often like to toss coins to decide our fate, but in reality, the moment we toss the coin, we have already made our decision in our hearts. We already made our decision as we toss the coin out. If the marked side is facing upwards, then I'll tell him my feelings tonight. If not, I suppose I'll wait a little longer. Is it heads or tails? Is there a mark? Looks like it's my turn to drink. Guess I'm not so lucky. Do I really have to wait longer to tell him how I feel? He did say that we have already made our decisions as we tossed the coin out. It seems like even the heavens are thinking the same thing as I am. Such a beautiful moonlight. What a waste that. It can't be made into alcohol. Why you're right. Why is she suddenly staring at me like that? Daoist friend Lu, can you tell me? What is love? Master asked me that exact question in the past as well. And now, even in this life, she's asking the same thing again. It feels like the past and present are overlapping now. I'm not sure what love is, but I do know the coolest moment for someone is when they don't have someone they love. This is the second time I'm telling you this. I did see. But. Ah. Look out. But, Taoist friend Lu. Right now, I'm not cool anymore. Dao, Taoist friend Lu, you don't actually have. Two. Give me a reply. It's better if you just pretend I never said anything. I mean, it's just a bunch of drunken nonsense. I've really embarrassed myself in front of you. I. Did she really fall asleep? Falling asleep right after confessing. Are you playing some new way of confessing? The techniques from the spring and autumn mountain amplify a specific desire while diminishing all other desires. Some people have their desire for affection amplified, so they express ten times more love than they actually feel. While others, who may feel ten times more love, can only express one-tenth of it. This is the difference in how different people express their emotions. Such a seductive scene would be hard for many people to resist. Flirting involves a string of witty remarks, while expressing affection may involve stumbling over one's words. We certainly prove the truth of this statement. Good night. I never thought I would consciously protect a girl's reputation. It seems that I have become deeply involved too. I suddenly remembered an old song. The wind, flowers, snow, and moon won't wait for anyone. If you want to offer, offer a kiss. Um, it's morning already. Um, what did I do last night? He heard everything. He heard everything. What should I do? Should I run away? Leave the MO sect? Even if I have to go, I need to hear his answer. But if his answer isn't the one I want to hear, what should I do? But, Jiang Xinyan, are you really willing to just leave it like this? There has to be a way. Vermilion bird fruit tree? The fruit from the tree that bears fruit with spiritual powers of the vermilion bird. 
He said adding vermilion bird fruit juice to the wine would make it taste better. So he remembered, is this what he gave to me? Hey, you drank so much last night, let's have some porridge this morning. I wanted to speak several times last night, but someone always interrupted me, talking about everything they wanted to say in a drunken state. Do you see that vermilion bird spirit fruit over there? Yes, I do. The moment I saw it, I realized that the fruit was from a spiritually awakened vermilion bird fruit tree. The first thing that came to mind was you. When I thought of that, I realized that something was wrong. This is not a good sign. It's really dangerous. Dangerous? But I still want to understand. Look over there. My heart is on the tree, have it if you want. My heart is up on the tree, have it if you want. I can have the fruit that represents his heart. If I pick the fruit from the tree, his heart will be mine. As long as I pluck it, his heart will belong to me from now on. I have e -E plucked it. Now, sit down and have some porridge. Okay. I'm curious. Curious about what? So what's our relationship now? I, 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 you, 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 I, I mean, the kind of. I understand. So what do you want to call me? I. Can I call you Taoist friend anymore? Of course you can. You can call me whatever you like. While they were flirting, someone was eagerly rubbing their fists for battle. Mm -hmm. These pastries are really delicious. They're so sweet and soft. They're really making my heart sing. I just don't know where my martial aunt is. She's in Qingzhou, but why didn't she come to me? Never mind. I can always find my martial aunt. My key task this time is to spar with sect leader Lu. After all, I've bet my entire fortune on this. My cute babies are still waiting for me to win the match and redeem them. Huh? Why are there so many people here? Camera 1 is in position. Camera 2 is in position. What's the point of filming if they go to Danqing Peak to fight? We'll be waiting for nothing. Do you think sect leader Lu will win? Number 1 star live stream. Ha, huh, how could sect leader Lu possibly lose? The point is how long it will take to finish the fight. Yeah, that's right. As expected of Boss Lin. Hey, it's my duty. According to the information, the MO sect belongs to the last of the 300 sects under the Sword Sect, yet it can still achieve this kind of popularity. Still, there are people who think he will beat me? All right, then let this holy saintess show you that a tiny fish of a pond can never win against a dragon in the open sea. There's an aura that's quite similar to yours, and they've entered Danqing Mountain. It's Pei Chan Chan. Daoist friend, do I chase her away? This brat, how dare she come and disturb my good time. I'll have to give her a good beating. It's fine, it won't take long. H.M.? Why is he here too? I am Yu of the Sword Sect. You must be Miss Pei Chan Chan, the Holy Saintess of the Spring and Autumn Mountains, I presume? You you from the sword sect, if it wasn't for your decent appearance, daring to stop me, the holy saintess, I would have to fight you first. Nice to meet you, it's our first time seeing each other. Lip twitch dark. Judging from his lip movement, he seems to be saying the word dark. He knows my identity, so he should be. Lip twitch sky. Right now, the two are in a rather peculiar state, which can be commonly referred to as meeting an online friend in person. You, you, the sword saint and sword attendant. The world's only flawless sword body. Oh my goodness, I am speechless. Why is he here too? Do you want to come with me? Hmm. This brat, I've bet quite a bit of money. Is he trying to ruin it for me? Do you want to get your head knocked down? I'll help you with that right now. Brother, you, you, I have come here to seek advice from the MO sect leader. After my training gets over, I'll come find you. Please excuse me, Senior Yu Yu. 
What a coincidence, I also came to seek advice from the sect leader Lu. You also bet, I mean, you also came to spar? You, you actually came to spar with the sect leader Lu? Is this to compete for the title of the top new talent in Qingzhou swordsmanship? This just got even more interesting. This is a big event. I don't care, I'm going to post about it. I'm going to make players from other provinces jealous. No, no, no. If I can't win, I'll lose everything I have. I still want to buy Jade Dragon and Warm Snow Rouge Velvet, and I also have my eye on the glass windbreak beads. Well then, why did Senior Yu stop me here? After all, the sect leader Lu must be busy with sect affairs. How about you and I decide the winner here first? The winner will go to seek advice, and the loser won't waste the sect leader Lu's time. How does that sound? So, does this mean that if I can't pass this test, I won't be able to meet the sect leader Lu anymore? This person really has no sense of etiquette. Causing trouble from the first meeting. Exactly. This kid, Yu Yu, has grown up and learned how to deceive people. How could I, a handoff man, be busy? But if Pei Chan Chan wins, it's fine. If she loses, the gambling house will rule it a draw. Then I won't be able to explain to Dong Li where those silver and spirit stones went. Wait for me a moment. Okay. Get out of my way. I'm not here for you. If you win, I'll naturally step aside. Stop it, both of you. Senior Lu, sect leader. Sect leader Lu? It was rumored that sect leader Lu's appearance is as beautiful as a fairy in a painting, and it's actually true. Are you all here to seek guidance? You like pretending to be unfamiliar, right, Yu Yu? I'll fulfill your wish. Pei Chan Chan, level 44, Yu Yu, level 45, yes. One level difference is not that big, and with a few more levels, they could still fight evenly. However, both of them are world protagonists, so it may not be an easy fight. As the two of you have come to seek my guidance, how would you like to go about it? I, Yu Yu, have heard of the extraordinary swordsmanship of sect leader Lu, and have come to seek guidance on swordsmanship, and hope to compete with you at the same level in order to gain some insights. Compete at the same level? Then wouldn't my combat method of relying on level suppression be useless? What about you? Same for me. Humph. I'm also the holy saintess of the spring and autumn mountains. Even if I suppress my level, I might not necessarily lose. All right, with the busy affairs of the MO sect recently, I don't have much free time. How about the two of you come at me together? Did you hear that? Our sect leader is going to fight two opponents alone. He really lives up to his name as our sect leader. Even if they are Sword Saint or the Holy Saintess of the Spring and Autumn Mountain, so what? Our sect leader is invincible. So boasting about being invincible in the world is nothing but hot air that will dissipate in a few years. However, my looks are truly invincible. Sect leader Lu, are you really that confident? As expected, only senior brother Lu can say such things. But if two people team up to spar with senior brother Lu and win, will the gambling house acknowledge it? If the gambling house doesn't acknowledge two versus one, then we also won't acknowledge gambling houses. Gamble house invalid, but if the gambling house doesn't acknowledge it, won't I still go bankrupt? What's the point of fighting then? Pei Chan Chan is more simple-minded, always thinking about family assets. Senior Brother Lu could only be my personal aspiration, but now there's Pei Chan Chan, what's going on? If Senior Brother Lu wins against us, that's okay. But if Senior Brother Lu loses, Senior Brother Lu's spirit will be crushed, it will become an inner demon in his path for cultivation, Yu Yu is more complicated. He wants to win, but he doesn't want Senior Brother Lu to lose. No need to think too much. If you two team up and defeat me, I will make time from my busy schedule to give you individual guidance. As long as we win against him, we'll have a chance to spar with him individually. We must win against Senior Brother Lu. That way, I can have a chance to receive personal guidance. We must win. As long as we win, my bet can be valid. Then let's do it. 
Please guide us, Senior Brother Lou. Okay, let's begin. Wow. The sect leader is going to take on two opponents at once. Junior sister, do you know who that woman is? Who is she? She is the Holy Saintess of the Spring and Autumn Mountains. She's also known as the Swordmaster, alongside Senior Yu H.M.? The Holy Saintess of the Spring and Autumn Mountains, who are the Sword Masters? Junior sister, before our master became famous, among the young generation in Qingzhou, Yu Yu was considered the number one, and this Pei Chanchian's position in Beizhou is comparable to that of Yu Yu. So if our master wins against them, doesn't that mean he becomes the number one in two provinces? It seems like you're not wrong. I also want to become the number one in two provinces in the future. It feels like seeing the little version of the sect leader here. He's always like this, full of energy. Sister Jiang. She, does she already know about what happened between me and Chaoga? Sister Jiang, do you think my brother can win? He will definitely win. Even though her cultivation level is lower than mine, why do I feel like I'm being overshadowed by her right now? Wow. It's starting, it's starting. The battle between Master Lu and the two prodigies of the younger generation has begun. Everyone, smash that follow button. Here it comes, this earth-shattering moment, I must record it well. Speaking of which, if Master Lu wins, then doesn't it mean that players from our Qingzhou are stronger than players from the Beizhou? Strongest in Qingzhou. Players from Beizhou do not accept this. The Holy Saintess cannot represent everything. Not all players from Qingzhou are from the MO sect. Strongest in Qingzhou. Misleading concept. Shame on you as an influencer. Isn't it a shame that you're using your power to mislead viewers? I don't care. As long as sect leader Lu wins, Qingzhou will be the strongest. Strongest in Qingzhou. Let's brush it up, brothers. Is the streamer mute? Is the streamer mute? Is the streamer mute? Lu Chaoga, he is the only man in my heart who rides on the colorful clouds. If I have to marry someone, I will only marry him. If you want to fight against me, I hope you will fight with all your strength and not hesitate to work together. If you fight alone, you will lose within ten breaths. Humph! Take this move. Try mine as well. Basic attack. Simple sword plus fourth level sword intent plus sound of slowness. This sword has stacked three layers of buff. Let's see if you can handle it. Ah, this sect leader is looking down on people too much. For the sake of my reputation, I must win. Senior Chauga, to what extent have you grown? Let me see. They're starting to fight. So strong. This level of battle is like a fight between immortals. Who will win? Look, someone is flying out. How, how did he do that? This shouldn't be possible. Why is it like this? How could this happen? Fourth level of sword intent. He has achieved the fourth level of sword intent, even though he's only at the third realm. He's too strong. Is he really one of the leaders of the lower hundred sect? Even sparring with a saint wouldn't feel as oppressive as this. Her spear is leaking electricity. Back when I had a gaming account, I was also a member of the Spring and Autumn Mountains. But I wielded my spear like a dragon, every shot like water, very different from her. Dragon deck ends the sea, unfortunate L.Y., that's my youth that I can never go back to. Did you guys hear that? He's at the fourth level of sword intent, yeah, we heard. What does it have to do with us? Check your attribute panel. How much experience do you need to level up to the fourth level of sword intent? I just calculated it. Fifteen million. If sect leader Lu was a player, he would need fifteen million experience points just for sword intent. Fifteen million, oh my god. I can earn two thousand experience points per day if I work really hard. So I would need. 7,500 days to accumulate 15 million experience points. That's just 20 years if you convert it. In 20 years, I can also reach the fourth level of sword intent. 
You're good at calculating, but don't do it again. Your math is really good. The more you calculate, the more I can feel the terror of sect leader Lu. So he's the legendary prodigy of heaven. Be careful, I'm going to take this seriously now. Here I come again. He actually reminded us? I thought we were just sparring. Basic attack, simple sword, fourth level sword, intent plus sound of slowness. Don't engage head on, spread out and make it hard for him to concentrate his attacks. Okay. They've joined forces? How interesting. But it's only interesting, nothing more. Water element cloud control. It's senior brother Chauga's water element. He's trying to obstruct my vision. How can he manipulate clouds? Let me break through. Everyone, back off. So fast. My hair? I caught your sword with mine. Mine sword second form. Mind Sword is a technique that directly attacks the mind, and since neither of them has broken through to the fifth rank, they couldn't resist the momentary loss of consciousness, it seems like it's over now. It seems the outcome is already decided. The outcome is not decided until the very last moment. Those two are the rising stars of Qingzhou and Beizhou. Yes, indeed. What's wrong with me? Why do I always feel suppressed by her? Those two seem to have no power to fight back. Is this the pressure from sect leader Lu? The outcome is already decided. Interestingly, they are worthy disciples of Sword Saint and Sword Master. Brother Chaga's sword is indeed powerful. It even made my mind foggy. But biting my lip and breaking free from the fog, there is nothing remarkable about it. That was close. I almost lost everything. For my livelihood, I must fight until the very end. If we don't use some of our hidden cards soon, we will lose when we meet again in the next round. It seems that the next strike will determine the outcome. What happened? I didn't see it clearly. I feel like I'm not worthy of seeing it clearly. Ugh. Ugh. That's enough. If he had released a faint sword energy just now, I would have been dead from a slashed throat. So he's really that strong. My fortune, my wealth, my... So many things I wanted to buy. So much money, so many spirit stones. With his one finger, he bankrupted me. Brother Chauga also practiced Sound of Slowness, and I also practiced Sound of Slowness, so why are we so different? His sword is more domineering than mine. That goes without saying that even the normal attack skill of Brother Chauga is a critical hit. How can it not be domineering? Could it be that Brother Chauga and I are on completely different levels when it comes to understanding this sword technique? Ah, that one finger, that one finger. The one finger attack that stopped at their throat actually hit my heart. Chaoga won. He won. Sister Jiang, you seem very happy that brother won against Miss Pei Chanchian. Hmm. Although I am the deacon of the spring and autumn mountain, and Pei Chanchian is the saintess of the spring and autumn mountain, but he won, I am happy. That's it for now. I need to hurry and let them go to the major gambling houses to collect the spoils. This round has accumulated a lot of resources for the young ones. Sect Leader Lu, please wait. Did Sect Leader Lu also comprehend the sound of the slowness technique from the sword inscription? This brat seems like he's trying to tilt his head little by little. You don't really recognize me as your big brother, do you? Yes. So it indeed was. As expected. Senior Brother Chauga, he has also been acknowledged by the first generation Sword Sovereign. What does he mean? I don't get what he means by that. Sword Monument, I think I've heard of it before. It should from the Sword Sect, but what does it have to do with their battle? The meaning behind you use words is that he's asking whether Sect Leader Lu has also been acknowledged by the first generation of Sword Sovereign. 
because the slowed sound is the sword technique used by the first generation sword sovereign to mark on the stone monument. Where you also comprehended the slowed sound. In other words, the two of them have actually both received the inheritance of the first generation sword sovereign? Exactly. As the saying goes, there can't be two tigers in one mountain, isn't that the current situation? Unless it's a male and a female. Yu Yu wants to ask Leader Lu for advice on the slowed sound. Woohoo! Another action comes. The fight between the successors of the inheritance of the first generation sword sovereign is on. Both have the same swordsmanship as the first generation sword sovereign. Who will emerge victorious? I've been waiting for quite a long time. Today, even if you become the world's protagonist, I have to knock your brains out. Go ahead. Are you not going to draw your sword? This venerable one doesn't have to draw his sword, so you can comprehend more. Really? Sai. Lin Ari the second round? The second round is coming? Awesome. Nice. Second round? Dopey Eye, this is like getting two benefits with one ticket. My man won't even draw his sword. He won't be in danger, right? Shame on you. He's my man. Shut up. He's my man. Shut up, all of you. My man is going to fight. Whoever makes one more noise, I'll be at war with her. Sick Leader Lu, here I come. Slowed sound beginning form. You lost. I lost. I lost just like that. Is that it? It's over? It's so fast. I haven't even gotten into the climax yet. What the heck? I just sneezed. What happened? With little you use temperament, can this little setback knock him down? Thank you for your guidance, Sect Leader Lu. Sure enough, this should be you you who is the protagonist of the world. Come with me, both of you. Yes. Sect Leader Lu. I'm here too. It's me. Me. Sword Sect's direct disciple, Chen Xiao. I'm sure you've all seen it today. The inheritance of the first generation sword sovereign in our sect leader's possession, that's right, everyone saw it. That is to say, if we go all the way up in the MO sect, from errand running disciples to outer disciples, and then, from outer disciples to inner disciples, won't there be a chance to learn the skills and techniques of the first generation of the sword sovereign's inheritance? Bro, you're such a genius. The first generation sword sovereign, I've read the introduction of the Tianqian information, so I know him to some extent. Legend has it that he was the last cultivator who have reached the ninth rank in the Tianqian world. After him, no one else has reached the ninth rank in Tianqian, he was truly the heaven's chosen one. The ninth rank. And the last one. Then wouldn't his inheritance be the best of the best? Holy cow! Unexpectedly, my little 8 rank MO sect is as deep as the sea. If I can learn it, by the time I reach a higher level, it will open a huge gap between me and these guys who learn garbage techniques. Only me sovereigns all, then in the future, the Tianqian world would be under me, MOBU Xiao. But what MOBU Xiao didn't expect was that everyone present had similar thoughts. I'm the only one who has favorability points from sect leader Lu. I'll be the one who gets the inheritance, for sure. Sect Leader Lu's gaze towards me is clearly distinct from that of the other female players. I must be the most special. Our feelings will grow deeper over time, and the inheritance will undoubtedly be mine. And Marshal Aunt Jiang, you're here. What's exactly going on? I'm done for. Why does that look familiar? As if it's saying, I'll deal with you in private, uh... This time, not only did I lose all my money, but I'd still have to be educated by my martial aunt. I'm so done for big time. Forget it, let it just pass. I just want to die, this world is not worth it. Senior Brother Chowga, long time no see. How are you doing? Call me Sec Leader Lu. What are you talking about, Senior Brother Chowga? We grew up together since childhood, how could we be so distant? Come here. 
Senior Brother Chowga, what is it? Senior Brother Chowga? Didn't he just refer to him as sect leader Lu? What's the deal with the relationship between these two? Calling me sect leader Lu when people are around, then calling me senior brother once they're gone, you really are a piece of work. You really want to get smacked. He actually smacked the sword sovereign's disciple. He, he's actually still laughing. He's actually still laughing after being smacked. What's in it for this guy to actually make the sword sovereign's disciple be so obedient to him? It feels as if he's actually you use senior. You can leave. All right. Oh no, he's looking at me. Eek. Why is he still looking at me? Are you waiting for me to speak? He's giving off such a strong sense of pressure, even though his rank is lower than mine. D does sect leader Lu have something to tell me? I simply wanted to let you know that you don't have to be so formal or distant, nor do you have to call me sect leader Lu. Logically speaking, you should actually call me Marshal Uncle Lu. I already lost all my money and got defeated in a two-on-one fight. Just stab me with your finger instead of continuing to embarrass me like this. How did you end up as my Marshal Uncle for no apparent reason? Marshal Aunt Jiang, as the deacon of Chuenchio Mountain, aren't you baffled by this situation? Hurry and say something. Huh? And Marshal Aunt Jiang actually nodded. Marshal Aunt Jiang, what exactly are you nodding for? Just how divine is this Lu Chaoka? My name is Pei Qian Qian, and I am the saintess of Chunqiu Mountain. Everyone falls for me at first sight, and the flowers bloom in my presence. But recently, I've gone bankrupt. At the same time, I've also met a really complicated man that I can't see through. That's right, it's him. The sect leader of MO sect, Lu Chaoga. He called himself my martial uncle, and it seems like my martial aunt Jiang doesn't refute it. All of these suspicious traits make me feel like he's hiding something. Marshal Aunt Jiang and this Lu Chaoga must have something going on. Why else would she be at M.O. Sect? Why wouldn't she refute his claim, even though she's the deacon of Chun Chiu Mountain? How dare he, a mere sect leader from the Hundred Lower Sects, be my martial uncle? Oh shit, this isn't just something, they're literally having an affair. Marshal Aunt Jiang, who is well known for being cold and serious in our sect to think she's having an affair with M.O. Sex sect leader, Lu Chaoga. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes, I wouldn't believe it. But looking at Marshal Aunt Jiang's expression, she seemed genuinely happy. Then there's no dissuading her. Even if I were to try, aside from not succeeding, I might get beaten up badly by her. It's too risky, too risky. But... Can I really let my martial aunt Jiang be cheated by that guy? As Chun Chiu Mountain Saintess, can I not even make a slightest protest? I got it. From today onwards, I'll live off MO sect from meals to accommodation. I'll get them all back for losing my martial aunt. But can a mere sect from the lower hundreds even serve good dishes? I was too naive to be thinking of leeching off them. Elder sister, if you're not hungry, can you give me your bowl? Humph, who said I'm not hungry? It's just that I thought these dishes don't live up to my status as Chun Chiu Mountain Saintus. H.M.? Wait, isn't this too delicious? Oh my god. Xiao Chiu wants to eat her fill too. I'm going to eat until M.O. Sect goes bankrupt. Qian Qian Shuer is an interesting junior. How embarrassing. So this is how it was. I finally understand why Marshal Aunt Jiang would fall for him. She amplified her desire for food. So Lu Chaoga would appear to be her perfect soulmate. However, this Marshal Uncle Lu isn't all that bad. Especially. Here, take it. It's a gift from your Marshal Uncle. Especially when he gave me a huge money gift. From that moment onwards, he looked so, so dashing. Marshal Uncle Lu, Marshal Uncle Lu. Did you know that our Marshal Aunt Jiang was the woman that not even our sect leader could conquer, yet you've won her over now? How amazing. H.M.? 
if Marshal Aunt Jiang were to bring Marshal Uncle Lu back to the sect. I wonder what the sect leader's expression would look like. It would surely be interesting, wouldn't it? Wow, look at all these bills. He he. Regarding Lu Chaoge and Jiang Xian Yan's romantic relationship, Yu Yu's reaction was vastly different. I can't believe it. I can't even wrap my head around it. Senior brother Chao Ji Yi and comrade Jiang, the, she's considered as my martial aunt in terms of seniority, so in the future. How should I address senior brother Chaoge? Little Yu Yu, from now on, you must address me as martial uncle as well. But, sect leader, all the winnings from the gambling halls have been gathered here. It's a total of over 20,000 spiritual stones and an immeasurable amount of gold and money. Great. This venerable one is in a good mood. Elder Dong Li, freely take as much as you want to buy spiritual herbs and the likes that aid in cultivation. Then, everyone can get a set of high-quality new outfits too. Aside from that, my reputation points are also increasing like crazy. This Pei Qian Qian has greatly helped me. Then, the next thing is to utilize Yu Yu. Regarding the Sword of Hades, it's time to let it progress. As Qing Zhou's main character, he should more or less know something about it. Senior Brother Chaoga, I still have my mission to finish up. Having stayed here for two days, I can no longer delay it. Is there anyone who still remembers that I've waited here for two whole days? Wait up, come with me. Senior Brother Chaoga, is there something you'd like me to do? What do you know about Hades? Hades, I feel like I've heard of that name somewhere. As I've expected as Qingzhou's main character, he must carry some clues. Based on the settings, it should be him leading the group of players in overcoming the main plot. I remember when it just started, the progress level was only at 6.7%. Sword of Hades current, progress level, 6.9%. Great. With all these new players' help, the progress levels have went all the way up by 0.2%. They sure are working hard. Senior Brother Chaoga, I've surely come across information about Hades before in my sect. Senior Brother Chaoga, you must have known that every living being doesn't just vanish entirely upon death. Instead, there are some traces left behind between heaven and earth. These fragments were to be led away. It could even give birth to such evil monsters, consuming negative emotions around them to grow. If left unattended, it will become a ghost king that will cause a calamity. Exactly. The Hades recorded in books is the strongest ghost in the history. He was one of the, the biggest catastrophes the whole world has ever faced. Not only is he the strongest ghost, but also one of the biggest catastrophe. Such an explanation does make sense. But I wonder if the books recorded anything else? like the strategies on taking him down. The books also state that its strength reached the ninth rank and that it was able to control Death Aura to create such monsters. Control Death Aura and create monsters, is there anything else? Such abilities, it sounds like a zombie king in those apocalypse novels who's continuously birthing new minions. That's all the books recorded. Hades was ultimately killed by Emperor Qing. It's Emperor Qing again. There have been a lot of stories and legends revolving around him lately. That little ancestor seems to be related to him as well. Oh right. Senior Brother Chaoga, although my knowledge of Hades isn't a lot. But two months ago, in one of the secret realms, I found this. This is. Soul Jade. Such a complete and big one. You randomly came across this in a secret realm? Yes, I was curious as I passed by the secret realm, while searching casually, I found this. So this is what it means to be the main character. Getting a secret technique from jumping off the cliff, discovering half a soul jade from casually wandering around the secret realm. You're literally getting spoon-fed by the god himself. Cough, controlling excitement, do you know what that is? I'm not too sure but it feels like it carries a lot of death aura and is very sinister. I believe it's related to Hades. You're too unknowledgeable. This is called a soul jade. Senior Brother Chaoga, you know what this is? 
if I'm not mistaken, soul jade are things left behind by Hades after he died. But they are often found in small pieces and usually existing in fragments. So it's rare to see such a big piece like this one. Senior Brother Chowga, then what exactly is its purpose? If it's absorbed by an evil ghost or monster, it could greatly strengthen them. If a living human were to absorb it, then I'm afraid they'll gain a terrifying power. However, power like this is uncontrollable and leads people down the path of a demon. Then we must destroy it immediately. Such an evil item, we can't let it exist in this world so that it wouldn't cause a future disaster. How barbaric. Do you think you can destroy it just like that? Huh? I thought destroying it directly would work. If you break it into pieces with a swing of your sword, the death aura will leak out and cause havoc all over the world. Besides, try attacking it with your most powerful swing. But won't that cause the death aura to leak out? Just try it. Yes. Well, what? How? It's extremely hard to break this thing. Physical attacks can't destroy it easily, but our M.O. sect has a secret technique that'll work. Senior Brother Chowga, when you destroy it, will you be under too much burden? No worries. Don't forget, this thing is evil. It'll cause disasters around the world. So everything we do is for the people of this world. Spiritual Wind Activated Senior Brother Chowga is so honorable. If I come across these things in the future, I'll seek your help again, Senior Brother Chowga. You may leave. All right. Senior Brother Chowga understands the righteous path deeply. He's the true role model for our generation of cultivators. I'll have to find all the soul jades and not let them taint the world. What a huge piece this is. I wonder if this would stuff Hei Ting up. He he. Maybe more and more of this size will show up in the future. I'm probably the only one to ever use the main characters as tools. Devour me. Devour me, devour me. This thing's ability to manipulate people's minds is quite strong. Hey Ting's probably the only one capable of absorbing its powers. Even though you use character is not bad, it's better if fewer people know about Hey Ting's situation. I believe in you, you but I don't trust this world. Right, seems like I can still use my facade as the guide, and that wouldn't play. With it, I can use the main characters as a tool to collect soul jades for me. After all, in the main plot line, the four regions of Tian Xian are all connected to the soul jades. Maybe you, you can give me a lift then. Making the main characters my tool and shill, as expected of me. After Hei Ting absorbs half of this soul jade, it'll be super easy for him to break through to the third rank. Then, only two third rank cultivators are left till we become a seventh rank sect. Luo Bing and Mo Dongfam are the best candidates. Speaking of which, Lu Bing went down the mountain to buy some spiritual pills and elixirs. She should be back by now, so why haven't she report back to me? I'll try looking for her with my spiritual consciousness. Spiritual Consciousness Why is she in my room? Is she giving me the new clothes she bought? Young Lord will definitely look good in this attire, right? Now that Young Lord is already with Miss Jiang. They're a great match, while I came from a lowly origin. A perfect match that seems destined to be together. Young Lord A young girl's affection is always so pure and innocent. Anyhow, I don't deserve the young lord's attention. I was born with a lowly background. Senior Jiang is a better match for the young lord. For someone like me, just looking at him from afar is enough. Because she was raised in a place like a brothel, she's more sensitive than others, having learned to read people at a very young age. But I don't remember doing anything special for her, was I? M. Totally none. Someone who's completely unaware of what he has done. So, what does she like about me? He probably did nothing, or he accidentally did something to be innocently loved so deeply by her. Huh, this is the young lord sent. Sigh, what a tiring day. 
I'm so considerate, letting my presence be known on purpose and walking the same path back. Young Lord. Fully prepared. Why are you here? Acting hard. I was hanging your newly made robe. You can take a look and see if you're satisfied. All right. Not only do I see it, but I also see something else. MHM, it looks great. Young Lord, I'll make tea for you. Here we go again, those pure but sexy gestures that urge people to surrender. Not bad. If Young Lord likes it, I can come over every day to make it. Man, are you really talking about tea? Ah. Pure but sexy vibe killer move fakely fall then. Disheveled clothes to turn people on technique. Be careful next time. Sinyan is a great cultivator who's in the sixth rank. It won't be hard for her spiritual consciousness to cover this small and tea dancing of mine. If she really sees anything. I'm afraid and tea dancing will be flattened. And my little hill will be gone too. Does young lord want to try on the clothes to see if they fit? I failed this time, but I'll seize my chance next time. I'll have the opportunity to get in contact with young lord someday. No need, I trust you with errands like this. Let's try it on. How do I look? Ahem, stop staring. Clean up the cultivation room and light a heart-settling incense. Uh, is young lord going into closed cultivation to break through? No, it's for your first senior brother. A big fat soul jade is waiting for him. All right. I'll prepare it right away. Now, where's that hey ting with almost no presence? Sometimes a disciple with a low presence is kind of troublesome. Meditation room. You brat. You're really good at hiding, huh? I had to use spiritual consciousness to search the entire Dan Ching mountain three whole times just to find you. It's really tiring to use spiritual consciousness to search for someone in a wide area. This brat has too low of a presence. Even though I didn't do anything, but since master wants to pinch me, so be it. Here, I'm giving you this half ball of soul jade. So huge. Master sure can get his hands on anything. That's right, this thing is really big indeed. Half of a whole ball, of course, it's big. Just to be safe, let me do a scan on it. Suggested to consume together with healing and recovery elixirs. That sentence has a much deeper meaning. What the system is saying is that if he were to consume this whole thing, his body would inevitably suffer from some serious injuries due to the heavy burden. But he won't die from it. Because if he does, the system will flash a red notice instead. Hey, hey Ting, let Master ask you something. How's the progress of your cultivation lately? Let's be even safer for a bit. If he has broken through recently, it'll be great for his absorption rate. So he's saying there was zero improvement. Don't move, let me check on your state. You brat, even though you're not some genius, you shouldn't have zero progress. I'm not sure why, but ever since I absorbed that fragment, no matter how I try to absorb spiritual energy, it's as though they can't be contained in my body, like... They're only taking a trip to play in my body. Once they're done, they'll leave my body. First rank, great completion. Could it be because I took the shortcut, so now I've reached the limit? Seems like his body constitution makes it hard for him to absorb any spiritual energy. Don't tell me he can only break through with the help of soul jades only in the future. He can only depend on the help of soul jades to break through. If I'm a trashy master, his future would be doomed for sure. Why is Master so quiet without a word? Is he unhappy with my progress? But fortunately, his Master is the Heaven's Chosen One. Why did Master suddenly smile instead? Close your eyes and clear your mind. It might not be as easy as before, so brace yourself. I put my complete trust in Master. Hey Ting's absorption of this kind of energy is different from when demon cultivators do it. They might sound similar, but it's actually completely different. Demon cultivators continuously eat others, consuming what belongs to other people. 
As for He Ting, he's purifying these vile things that would taint the world. Ugh, how loud. The shadow behind him is changing forms. That shadow, why does it look strange? He's bowing at me? A shadow getting revived, bowing at a live person. If it was anyone else, it would give them a scare to death. But for Lu Chaoga, he felt like he deserved to receive that bow. It might be thanks to the soul jade that I found that this shadow can take on such a form. It's not illogical to receive this bow. The shadows that are getting burned are the evil spirits and beings in this world. If no one purified it, then it'd cause a disaster one day. Since they're all supposed to go to hell after all. And in this moment, Hei Ting is like the hell that deals with their sins. Truly, sending them straight to hell. Third rank, breakthrough, this fast? Third rank, first heavenly layer. Third rank, second heavenly layer, third rank, third heavenly layer, good for you. This is even better than the experience points I accumulated in earnest. He doesn't need to do a single thing. I even gave him the soul jade for free. Is this what it feels like being a master? Master disciple experience gained 150,000 points. Great. As expected of my amazing disciple, Quickly, level up more and more. Keep going. Third rank's fourth heavenly layer, ugh. Third rank, fifth heavenly layer. Third rank, sixth heavenly layer. Seems like being the master of this brat isn't that easy. Is he even the great demon king? He's obviously more like a living soul cleansing treasure in the world. Purifying evil, and at the expense of his own body, where can you find another demon king like this? I wonder if I'll get the chance to meet that half-blind old man too. If we meet, I'll definitely beat him to death. It should be here. I was right. Have you brought what I asked for? Then, the thing I want? Humph, naturally I won't cheat you. The item is fine. Then I shall give you what you wanted. To think the dignified heavenly secret tower master, the one known to be able to peek into heaven's plans, would do an exchange with the demonic cultivators at the Purple Moon Association for Soul Jade, hey, old man, what do you even want that for? Didn't you say you're giving me a whole soul jade this time? Old man, it seems you know nothing about soul jade. The soul jade that I gave you is what you call a useful, whole soul jade. Useful? What do you mean? Soul Jades are the powers of the Hades that got dispersed, old man. They should be complete to begin with. But, if you were to complete them, the power inside can no longer be absorbed. So it needs to be incomplete. If it's completed, then it means it's sealed. Then you can just give me the whole Soul Jade, and I'll find a way to break the seal myself. To break a soul jade seal, you would need the strength of a ninth rank cultivator. But you? Are you even a ninth rank? This soul jade was cracked many years ago. There shouldn't have been any ninth rank cultivators during that time. What kind of person managed to unseal this soul jade? You want to know? Can you tell me? I know the answer, but I don't want to tell you. Aren't you very good at fortune telling? Foretell it yourself. You. Humph. Then this old man will see how this bastard will end up. W.H. Watt is this. How can it hinder my movements? Disappeared? He, unknown I've seen your end. Humph. You want to scare me? Your name is Chumhui, right? You pretend to act like a god. You know my name because of the information from the heavenly secret tower. Right? If that is what you think, then so be it. He'll be killed by a black sword. There's no need for nonsense with the person who's on the verge of death. Wait a minute, a black sword. That person's sword is black. 
It can't be a coincidence like that, right? This old man heard that your Purple Moon Society's fortress somewhere on the Qinglong River was wiped out by a young sword cultivator who was only in the second realm. Humph, old man, don't ask unnecessary questions. Seventh Moon Envoy, Yao Yi died there, even though her position is the Seventh Moon, but her strength was not stronger than mine. The reason why she was Seventh Moon is because she was special. It was the day she became one with the Scarlet Owl on this altar. The blood and divine spirit of the Scarlet Owl flowed into her body. Too bad. If Yao Yi was beheaded, it was likely that Scarlet Owl would recover. How did this little sword cultivator named Lu Chaoga kill the Scarlet Owl? Until now, within the Purple Moon Society, it is still an unsolved mystery. Qinglong River Fortress was destroyed. Is your Purple Moon Society not planning to do something against that little M.O. sect? Humph. Don't ask questions that shouldn't be asked. Please leave. Hey, is the Purple Moon Society unable to resist showing its scars? I, old man also should go to put his pawns on the 16th chess piece. Dingzhou border Linhai village. Recently some aunties in this village started competing intensely due to the emergence of a certain middle-aged Confucian scholar. These aunties have been coming to this small street more and more frequently lately, sometimes even rushing into the house. Recently a very strange thing happened. From today don't call me master, call me grandpa. I first called him grandpa, then called him master, now for some reason, I'm calling him grandpa again. Ji Chang Kong accepted Lu Dongli as his disciple, I accepted Lu Dongli's disciple as mine, then wouldn't I be a disciple of Ji Chang Kong? No, no, that can't be happen. I straight up accept him as a grandson. I, I, I teach him as a grandson with the status of his grandfather. Senior Luo, this junior has been bothering you for half a month, so it's time for me to leave. Oh. It's just that before leaving, this junior wants to see the Eye of Chaos just once, is it possible? Is Lord Sword Sovereign leaving? Is the Eye of Chaos also a well? You really want to see that? Yes, I want to see that. Then take him with you. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, what ah? Uh? Now that you've received the inheritance from this old man, it's time for you to know your own duty. Let's go. Where is the young lad? Why did he suddenly disappear? Qingzhou outskirts, the endless sea. Eh, Grandpa, is the Eye of Chaos here? It turned out not a well, but the sea. Boy, Eye of Chaos is in the deepest part of the endless sea. With your current cultivation base, you still can't see it. Grandpa, what is the Eye of Chaos? The Eye of Chaos is where monsters appear. Monster? The monster that first appeared in Tianqian world came from the Eye of Chaos that was in the depths of the sea. Grandpa, then let's hurry up and close it. When you grow up, if you have the ability, then it would be a great contribution if you could destroy it. Eye of Chaos, how great is it? The reason why Senior Luo was assigned to the small fishing village that whole year was to deal with the monsters that emerged from the Chaos Eye. Senior Luo is Qingzhou's first line of defense outside the Eye of Chaos. Grandfather, he turned out to be a very great man. One man, one sword, equal to a high wall by the sea. If this old man dies, this task will be your responsibility. Me, I, can I carry this burden? It's too heavy. If I can't do it, wouldn't that mean, wouldn't that mean? Isn't this old man still alive? If you want to carry this burden, it's not your turn yet. Moreover, for the past nearly 10,000 years, the Eye of Chaos has not experienced any problems. This beautiful and timid child is able to get recognition from Senior Luo. Senior, did you really choose that child? This child is a little timid but has great courage. If Senior Luo didn't misjudge him, someday this kid might be wielding the most dashing sword in the world. Since the Eye of Chaos is safe, this junior will leave first. You may. Grandpa, can I see the Eye of Chaos for a moment? Foolish brat. With your current cultivation base, even just looking at it for a moment can make you lose your mind and soul in an instant. Ouch. Ah. 
That's how great that is. Yam Shu, how long has it been since this old man sealed your cultivation base? Grandpa, so far almost a year and a half has passed. And a year and a half is also a pretty solid foundation and also it's enough for you to sharpen. Does that mean that Grandpa is going to open my seal? This lineage of ours requires us to keep passing it down, generations to generations. Once you've digested this bit of true chi from me, then only can you cultivate the true hidden sword arts and preservation techniques. Okay. My seal has come undone. Third rank, breakthrough. After one and a half year of accumulation, broken through from first to third rank in one go. Why hasn't it ended yet? Third rank, seventh heavenly layer, third rank, eighth heavenly layer, third rank, ninth heavenly layer. If this goes on, he might end up breaking into fourth rank. Half a soul jade orb sure is strong. You received a notification from system. System notification? Congrats. MO sect has gained another third rank cultivator. Another one? Who is it? Is it Luo Bing? Or MO Dong Fong? Spiritual consciousness expand, let me see. That brat. To think he made so many Monkey King statues that are magically reformed. That little aura radiating from him. It's not him who broke through. Could it be Luo Bing? Tonight, I have to work harder. I have to persist every day. So that it'll naturally become bigger. Keep going, Luo Bing. For young lord's sake. Hmm, she's not cultivating at all. Then could it be Xiao Qiu? That can't be, or could it be, with her level 9 luck, she got some kind of encounter. Let's see. This beef, why is it so hard to chew on? Hmm. Spiritual consciousness return, since it's neither of my disciples on the mountain, then it can only be the ones journeying outside. Good job, to have brought honor to us M.O. sect. Although all of them were specifically hand-picked by me, but to have suddenly broken into third rank, I'm assuming they had some kind of great opportunities. Most of my direct disciples came from the Zao Li district. Seems like Zao Li district really is overflowing with talents. Luck. 3.1415926, perhaps, it has something to do with my special luck as the chosen one. It's a new day. Fourth rank, first heavenly layer. Great, to think he has ranked up a whole lot from his master. But it's nothing special too, since I just finished defeating two main characters who are around level 40-something. Congratulations for receiving the Master Disciple Mission Reward. Damn. Few hundred thousands of experience points. I'm taking back my words. It sure is great to see my disciple level up. I, I'm fourth rank now? It must be thanks to Master. He looked after me the whole night. I truly owe him everything. Get up. You know I don't like these kinds of things. Don't move. Let me check on your state first. Spiritual consciousness sensing. Huh? Hey Ting, he, he's gone? Where is he? Where did he go? How strange. He was clearly just here earlier. Wait. This brat's talent skill is, even if I'm right in front of you, you still won't be able to feel my extremely non-existent, low presence skill. Could it be? Spiritual consciousness. Damn. Just as I thought. One more time. Spiritual consciousness. Spiritual consciousness, retract. What the hell? It's real. This brat is literally a natural assassin. He can kill without a single noise, trace, shadow. Furthermore, he has a shadow that might be even be stronger than him. In desperate times, he can be too fourth rank. Half a soul jade orb can trigger such a reaction. I wonder how many more orbs are there in this world. According to Yu Yu, soul jades are what Hades left behind after being killed by the Emperor Qing. It's the fragments of his strength. 
Then, if I were to work hard and collect all the soul jade pieces, I would have a rank 9 disciple, or at least a rank 8. Won't I be carried easily? Not bad. As expected of me. Next, let this master of yours pass down a set of secret techniques to you. It's highly likely to have originated from the first generation sword sovereign. Originated from the first generation sword sovereign. Look carefully at how my spiritual aura flow. This set of technique looks simple and average, but it'll enhance each of your strikes by multiple times. That's right, I'm passing down the normal attack skill to Hei Ting. Each attack will unleash a blast. It works best for assassins who reside in the dark corners. Have you memorized it all? Then, give it a try. He memorized it so fast? I relied on the system to learn this skill. So I just randomly let out some moves earlier. If he really learned this, then I can only say, I truly am a genius. This brat's comprehension skills are actually that high. I only showed it for one time, but he's already familiar with it. But not bad. You really did demonstrate the set of techniques properly. However, that's unusual. Hei Ting has never been one of those genius types. How did he learn this so fast? There is always something wrong if it's unusual. Does your body have any discomfort? Do you have any troubles with cultivating or something has been affecting your mind? Nothing at all. Could it be, this presence less disciple of mine, he's actually one of the main characters in this world too? No, that can't be. If that's really the case, the balance will get tipped over again. Seems like the reason he learned so fast is. All due to his master who's the chosen one by the heavens. Let's go outside and get some sunlight. Hey Ting, the next sword asking day day that's held once every three years, I won't be taking part in it. You're my only disciple and M06 M06 first senior brother of this generation. Therefore, it only makes sense for you to stand firm on your own. M06 can't just be strong because of my strength alone. I have to let everyone know that even my disciples are extraordinary. Then, MO6 reputation points will increase like crazy. Hee hee, all those sec missions will be a piece of cake. But what I need now is to create an opportunity for the world to learn of my disciples' greatness. He looks pretty rough around the edges for now though, so I need to find someone suitable to help him achieve fame. Isn't the best tool at home right now? Fair skin. Pretty and with long legs perfect fit for sparring with my rough disciple. You rarely sparred with your peers, so you don't know a single thing about your actual strength right now. I'll find you a good partner to practice with. Seize this opportunity. Practice partner? What's there to Chuenchio Mountain Saintus? If it's time to work, then she ought to work too. M.O. Sec doesn't take in any useless people. M.O. Sec's practice grounds. She's my practice partner? Why do I have to spar with him? Isn't he Marshall Uncle Lou's disciple? How can a mere second rank spar with me? Wait, this guy is actually fourth rank. Brother, isn't Hei Ting's rank different from yesterday? Furthermore, it's so much higher that it's ridiculous. He was still second rank just yesterday. I used some small tricks. It really is because of Daoist friend. It really is because of brother. Small tricks? How can small tricks help him break through two ranks? Let me test this small trick then. Want to spar with me? Fine. Let me see exactly what you can do. I'm the saintess of Chuenchio Mountain after all. Yet I've fallen so low as to become a practice partner for the MO sect. I must at least spar with grace and with strength. Huh, why does that sound wrong? I'll use spiritual consciousness to lock on that brat. Let's see how you dodge this. Huh? Where is he? He's still here. I can't use spiritual consciousness to catch him. 
Is this the strength of Marshall Uncle Lou's only disciple? His techniques are really similar to Marshall Uncle Lou, but it's still far from his strength. Praise me. Hurry and praise me. I won against Marshall Uncle Lou's only disciple. Brother, Hei Ting doesn't suit a sparring location like this stage. Exactly, Taoist friend. How about not limiting the sparring grounds to just this arena and let Hei Ting do what he wants? Aside from ignoring my win, you're even asking me to spar again? I want him to lose a few more times so that he can grasp his own strengths and weaknesses. Once more. Damn it. If not for the delicious food in here at M.O. Sect, I'd have turned my head and left. He completely disappeared? Just now, that wasn't his full strength? Huh? He disappeared again. Really, he's just like a ghost. But I'm Chun Chio Mountain Saintus, don't look down on me. Humph. You lost. Humph, his ability to disappear and reappear like a ghost is challenging, but after all, he just entered fourth rank. I, Pei Qian Qian, is much stronger. This time, they can't deny it anymore, right? There are improvements, but unfortunately, he's still quite unfamiliar with controlling this ability of his. Exactly. If he can restrain it a little bit more, it'd work better. They won't even give me a look? Hey. Continue to practice with her. This time, focus on hiding your presence and only showing your skills as support. Again? I'll have to charge extra if this goes on. Damn it. I didn't even say yes to it. What are you bowing for? Chun Chiu Mountain Saintus seems to be showing attitude. I have to encourage her a little so she'll continue to be my tool to use. Hey Ting, remember to hide your presence better. If you can do that well, then there's a 70% chance of defeating Chun Chiu Mountain Saintus. What? Defeat me? Come. Use all your strength. I want to see if you can really defeat me or not. Unwilling to lose. Burning with that determinations. Let's go. We can watch on while drinking tea over there. Hey, she must have no clue that her passionate spirit is actually just for me to bend and use to my will, right? Hey Ting's mastering that skill really well now. But it is quite impossible if he wants to defeat Pei Qian Qian. This guy is getting better at his skill with each round. To think I can't even hear a single sound from him anymore, only depending on my instinct. So Marshall Uncle Lou had that in mind when he asked me to practice with him. This guy, he's improving too fast. But how can I possibly lose? Trying to escape? It's too late. Beastly binding. I'm cornered. Although your ability is extraordinary, but if you run into someone with the enlightenment of heaven and earth, you still can't win. The reason being, your basics aren't solid. Aside from reaching fourth rank and that strong swordsmanship technique, there aren't much left. W.Y. am I being so fierce to him? What if I won't get to stay and eat at M.O. Sect anymore because of that? He is Marshal Uncle Lou's first disciple after all, won't I be shaming him if I do this? As expected of Chun Chiu Mountain Sanctus. Hey Ting, try to learn more from her. Qian Qian, follow after this venerable one for a bit. Oh no, I definitely offended him. Marshal Ant, save me. I'm done for, Marshal Ant Jiang is ignoring me. Will Chun Chiu Mountain Saintus die and be forgotten from here onwards? My name is Pei Qian Qian. Just moments ago, I humiliated the handsome number one talent in all of Qing Zhou. Now, he's bringing me to somewhere that no one knows of. I'm afraid he's going to kill me to keep this a secret. I'm running out of time. Is there anyone who knows how to escape this? We're here. Here? To the death row? I'm doomed. The makeup from Yang Forest, the perfume from T.I. Yao, the lipstick from Vanilla Scents, goodbye, oh, and master, goodbye. Qian Qian, I wanted to ask you. I still want to live. 
Ah, uh, please don't. I wanted to ask you, and Beijou, Soul Jades have appeared there too, right? What? Soul Jade? That's right. To think you know about this too, Marshal Uncle Lu? That scared me to death. And here I was wondering what this was about. But it was just this. That thing isn't worth much anyways. The matter with the soul jade is extremely important. Keep in mind not to leak it to outsiders. This remains Chun Chiu Mountain's top secret. Don't trigger a wave of fear in people's hearts. The first thing you must do after gathering the soul jades is to submit it to the sect. However, Chun Chiu Mountain is extremely strict with how they deal with the soul jades. They don't allow us to spread info about it. Ching Zhou Sword Sect should deal with it in the same way. So how did Marshal Uncle Lu find out about it? This venerable one doesn't only know about its existence. I've even gotten rid of some of the shards. What? Marshal Uncle Lu, when you say got rid of it, do you mean sealing or destroying it? Got rid of it? Can those things be gotten rid of? Of course it's the latter. Destroyed it? Even if it's the Sword Sovereign, it was said that he couldn't personally destroy them either and could only seal them. Indeed, he was one of the strongest cultivator in this world, known throughout the lands. However, Qian Qian, do you think he was invincible and there was nothing he couldn't do? That, of course not. You don't have to be that shocked either. Just like the birds could fly, the fishes could freely swim. Throughout this world, everyone has something that they are good at. It's a really simple logic. Of course I know that logic, but the problem is, there wasn't a single person who could destroy the soul jade fragments even though there were so many people on Chun Chiu Mountain. Yu Yu came all the way to Mo Sec this time to deliver a soul jade fragment, requesting for this venerable one's help to deal with it. Great. That expression shows that she has taken the bait. Keep this up and become my number one tool. Huh? You found out about this secret earlier than I did? No wonder he showed up here. I thought he came just to get in my way. Yu Yu is the direct disciple of the Sword Sovereign. Could it be the Sword Sect had long since knew about Marshal Uncle Lu's ability? Something as vile as the Soul Jade, sealing it takes up a lot of Master's spiritual energy. Using the same logic, the Sword Sovereign will take up a lot of spiritual energy just to seal them off equal footing. With Marshal Uncle Lu's ability, Sword Sovereign won't have to waste his spiritual energy anymore. And if that goes on, the Sword Sovereign will become stronger than Master Saint. Ching Zhou will become stronger than Bei Zhou. Marshal Uncle Lu, if I also have some soul jades, can I come to you just like you, you did and ask that you deal with them as well? I. Pei Qian Qian, Chun Chiu Mountain Saintus, will not allow that to happen. Activating his acting talent, oh no. Marshal Uncle Lu looks really troubled. Could it be that he has come to some agreement with the Sword Sect on a secret deal? That's why he was willing to help out. The timing has ripened, if I delay it any further, it'll become a problem. Forget it. You are Xian Yan's beloved junior. Even before meeting you, I have already heard a lot about you from her. Are really? Marshal Auntie truly thinks of me. This venerable one can help you destroy the soul jades. But you must promise me something. Of course it's fake, she hasn't mentioned her even once. W what is it? If it's money, I can't really, after all, I have none. Master probably wouldn't give me extra too. This matter must not be told to anyone under any circumstances without my permission. No problem. That's all. If that's it, I can do another ten promises. But isn't it a big issue to deal with the soul jades for Marshal Uncle Lu? I must keep a secret and only pass him the soul jades that I have gathered myself. Since he's Marshal Andy Zhang's man, I can't ruin him. Furthermore, it can't be possible that every time I leave the mountain, I'll run into a soul jade, right? This time, she guessed it right instead. As one of the main characters of this world, she really will run into a soul jade every time she leaves the mountain. 
Aside from making Chun Chiu Mountain Saintess run my errands, I still have an important thing I need to tend to. By simply standing here, I shall take on Bei Zhou's main plot mission. As everyone knows, different regions have their own main plot missions. Qing Zhou's main mission is called King Hades Sword. The final boss is a swordsman who revived from the dead. Qing Zhou. Bei Zhou's main mission is called Nirvana of Evil Spirits. The final boss is a terrifying demonic beast who revived from the dead. As a Bei Zhou player in my former life, I'm much more familiar with the main mission there compared to Qing Zhou's. If I can take over their main mission, then it'd be as if I gained another hack. But for now, most importantly, can I do it through this little lady? Qian Qian. Let's start the plan. What is it, Marshal Uncle Lu? He's not thinking of retracting it, right? Qing Zhou hasn't been quite peaceful these days. Is there anything similar at Bei Zhou? There is indeed some strange things happening. But I'm not quite clear on the specifics. But my master did leave the mountains for that reason. Thankfully, he's not retracting the deal. But I don't know much about this matter either. After the Saint Master left the mountain, did he discover anything weird? He didn't tell me anything. He rarely talks to me about things like this. He treats me like a three-year-old. You sure are aware of that at least. H.M. Marshal Uncle Lou. Do you know something? She's even trying to gain info from me. Qian Qian. Because of Xian Yin, I see you as my own junior too. If you have anywhere you might need my help from now on, just let me know. No need to be reserved. I can really ask you for anything? Naturally. For example, getting my help to investigate the strange happenings in Beijou. Then, can I borrow money too? Damn it. Can't believe she's trying to leech off me now. Whatever. Let me show you what adult speaking skills are like. If your martial aunt has no problem with it, then of course it's fine with me. Ah, uh, that. If your martial aunt doesn't agree to it, then I can still help you a little bit privately. Marshal Uncle Lou, you're the best. She's so happy over a small amount of money. Truly, you're the best errand runner instead. Back to the main point. Ching Zhou hasn't been that peaceful lately. I believe Bei Zhou's strange happenings aren't that simple as well. You can pay more attention to this matter. No problem. If there's anything I struggle with, I'll ask for your guidance, Marshal Uncle Lu. Do you want to join Bei Zhou's main mission, Nirvana of Evil Spirits? Yes, no. Okay, it finally triggered. Yes, from today onwards, I'm standing in the front lines of both main plot lines. Get ready and prepare my rewards. Brother and Pei Qian Qian have gone in there for so long. Why haven't they come out yet? Should we use spiritual sense to check? Wait a bit more. He must have had some important matters. Humph. Really, why must there be creatures called sister-in-law in this world? Furthermore, she's standing right in front of me. And I can't beat her even if I want to. A younger sister should have suffice. Why must there be a sister-in-law? Brother's back. What did you talk so long with Qian Qian about? I'll tell you later tonight. It's getting dark. How about we have a drink together? Are you thinking of indecent things in that mind of yours? What I have in mind is 100 times more indecent than what you're thinking of. Humph. Humph. I'm going to be rich. Rich. What should I do? Follow Elder Dong Li out or wait for Master. After all, I've already lost a few matches. Master must be mad at me, right? Come. After sparring with Pei Qian Qian for three matches, do you understand your strength and weakness better now? I'm more or less know now. But I'm not sure if it's the same as what Master is thinking of. Don't look so glum all day and night. It doesn't feel great to look at. I can tell that after two rounds of sparring, you have grasped your strength. Work on it, and one day, you won't lose to the Saintess or the Sword Sovereign's direct disciple. You. 
Are Lu Chao Ji's disciple after all? The moonlight tonight is marvelous. Hmm. You can tell me now, right? What did you talk to Qian Qian about? Matters related to the soul jade. My instincts tell me that things won't be as peaceful these days. If that's the case, we can just get rid of the source of unpeacefulness? Well said. Her straightforward nature. That's what attracted me to her. That's right. Qian Qian gave me a suggestion. What is it? She suggested for me to visit Chen Chiu Mountain with you soon, to meet someone. She also added something else. I'm telling you in advance. Our sect leader was rumored to have pursued Marshal Aunt Jiang before. You might make the sect leader unhappy when you visit. Rumors relating to the sect leader being spread, yet the person himself didn't appear to dismiss it. Then it's most likely true. Who could have thought the flower I plucked was the one fancied by Chen Chiu Mountain's sect leader? This, I'm afraid it'll bring you troubles. It doesn't matter. I'll have to follow you back there one day anyways. At most, there'll just be some people who won't be too happy to see me and try to make it difficult for me. That's all. It won't come to the point where the sect leader personally get involved, right? Did Qian Qian tell you? Those are old stories in the past already. I don't even remember how many years it's been. That was the sect leader's loss. I must go, anyhow. Even if it's a mountain of blades and sea of flames, even if there are nine rank ten cultivators who would beat me up, I'll still want to go. True. What is there he's afraid of? Then, when do you want to follow me back to the sect? These few days, perhaps? So soon? Anyhow, I definitely won't let go of you. I still want to make dinners for you for the rest of my life. Do you really mean it when you said you'll cook for me for the rest of our lives? Of course. Why did she suddenly become so serious? Then I want to eat stewed lamb, steamed bear paw, steamed deer tail, roasted flour duck, roasted pigeon, roasted goose, stewed pork, braised duck, soy sauce chicken, three-layer pork. Stop reporting it. Who did you learn this from? Aren't all of these from the real world? I was taking a stroll at Danqing Mountain and heard the Arand running disciples from M.O. Sec chattering. I listened on for a bit since it's interesting. Who knew those are all pretty delicious sounding dish names? Damn it. The cultures are mixing up together. I know those dishes are mostly unheard of for most people so it might be hard to make for you too. I can just not eat it. After all, anything you make, I love to eat them. She did magnify her desire for food. Yet, she's willing to suppress her own desire for my sake. Magnifying is an easy feat, but controlling it is extremely difficult. As long as it's something you want to eat, nothing is too difficult for me. If you don't believe in that, we can sign as proof. You promised then. Even if she's a woman who kills ruthlessly, she's still satisfied and happy over a little thing like this. This is exactly why she's the cutest. I'm done with it. Take a look. H.M. Lu Chao Ji promises to cook a lifetime worth of delicious food for Jiang Xian Yan. If he's unable to fulfill it, he will be punished to beg for money outside, get bitten by dogs, drink fake wine for the rest of his life. Your punishments, sure, are super specific. I think they are punishments that can frustrate you, but not enough to harm you. Even when we're writing up a contract, she's still thinking for my sake. I'm signing it now. Next, it's time to put a stamp on it. Stamp? Why you, where are you stamping? The stamp is complete. The contract is now in effect. Master's taste, how great. But that aside, everything should go step by step. If I go too fast, I'll get in trouble. W what stamping, what kind of stamping is that? If we were to stamp, we have to go all the way. Stamping, huh? Brother, sister-in-law, everyone, don't forget that Dong Li's spiritual sense covered the entire Danqing mountain, so...
So, should I wish them well or get angry? Such complicated feelings, I don't know, I don't know anymore. Should I peek further? Just peek. Isn't that what you want to see the most? What are your opinions? It's a waste not to look. Then I shall. It's covered up by water mists. If I forcefully enter, brother will notice. If brother knew I peeked at them, he'll get mad at me, right? If I really acted so willfully, will brother come to dislike me for that? Sigh. The price to pay for being obedient is self-reflection. Here. The juice that senior sister told me to give you. Thanks, Xiao Qiu. Woohoo, this sunbathing suggested by the errand running disciples sure are comfortable. The players are working hard on sharing their worldly culture. Humph. If not because you can spar with senior brother and sister, you would have long since been kicked out. Because of you, Xiao Qiu hasn't eaten to her fill recently. Even though you're so skinny, why do you eat so much? Young lord, our errand running disciples have reached the peak of the beginner's rank. Even though the minority have to reach it, they are 70 to 80 percent there. Are there anything else concerning them? This bunch of players have slowly reached level 10 too, just as I expected. Yes, but it's a bit hard to say. Go ahead. What kind of things are they doing that I can't accept? Their daily lifestyle is a bit weird. Some people are constantly investigating how to tea take off their pants. Some people are chasing after female disciples like crazy, saying things like let me be your simp and other weird things. And they've been saying things like wanting to climb trees, saying they are Tian Xian world's tree hugger. As expected of noob players, Xian Yin seem to have been influenced by them. Tian Xian world will get distorted further with time. You may go. Continue to supervise their actions. If the timing's right, do show some guidance to them. Yes. Since their levels are reaching level 10, the main plot should have progressed too. Let me take a look. King Hades' sword, progression level 7.4%. It increased a little again. Every time it hits 10%, the system will send over some rewards. These new players should work harder. The effort of hundreds of thousands of players, let it rise a bit higher. It seems like the trigger to a big wave for this main mission in Qing Zhou will have to depend on this venerable one, who is the chosen one. I need to choose a good time to leave the mountain and start that wave. Accumulated experience to be used 99995469. After all, I have accumulated experience points that I can use now. From the Master Disciple mission, rewards from the new players, and my own mission rewards, I'm almost at 10 million, and that isn't even including the experience points I stored for 28 years. If the first wave for King Hades' sword mission goes well, then I will naturally get the highest reward. I wonder what kind of good things will the system give me? The chat world with the main characters, has it started again? Let me take a peek then. After all, their intel are often what brings forward everything in this world. After all, they are a bunch of people who get spoon-fed by God himself. Wind everyone, everyone. I'm sure you have heard of my recent incidents, writes. Earth getting beaten up by M.O. sect. We have heard about that. Golf plus one, sky. As expected of me, worming my way into the main character's world without doing anything. Wind how hateful. You guys don't know just how strong the sect leader is. If you're so capable, why not challenge him yourself? Earth, if I get the chance to go to M.O. sect, I'll also ask for some guidance from him. Gold same goes for this humble monk. If I remembered correctly, this baldy's cultivated the art of silence, but he's still able to chat in this group chat. That means he's only shutting his mouth, but he can still talk via chat? Guess it's a loophole bug then. There's no meaning in letting them chat like this any longer. How about I sow a seed and see what kind of intel they have? Guide everyone, please be silent for a bit. The guide showed up. Guide. He hasn't spoken in years. Today, I'm afraid something big is going to happen. That's right, Lu Chao Ge has dipped from this chat for years. 
truly dip to the bottom. Guide, remember well what I am about to say next. A calamity is about to fall on Tian Quan. Everyone, you need to pay more attention to everything and every incident happening around you. Calamity falling on us. Could it possibly be related to what Marshall Uncle Lou mentioned? Calamity, could it be? Let me confirm it. Sky, Senior, can you reveal a bit more? What kind of calamity is it? Great, look at you go. This venerable one was waiting for you to ask that. Guide, the reappearance of Soul Jades. Soul Jade. It really is that. Soul Jades contain a massive amount of evil energy within them. Furthermore, not even the Saint Master can destroy it. If such a thing continues to spread, there's a huge chance that many demonic cultivators who yearn after such power will be born on top of those who are already around in the first place. They will only grow stronger. This is truly a case of calamity. But, gold, soul jade? IQ picked up a small shard last month when I hunted down a demonic beast. Guide small shards aren't a big deal for now. However, in the grand scale of things, it's likely that a big amount of soul jades will appear soon. It doesn't matter how many you guys pick up. What's more important is, I need to find a way to get them to me. After all, my disciple Xiao He needs it. Level plus one level plus one level plus one. Gold, but the most worrying part is that the soul jades can't be destroyed. Gold I have asked my master after acquiring the shard, but they told me they are unable to fully destroy it even with their strength. This baldy sure is hard working. Your master is that holy monk from the Buddhist sect, right? If so, let me add some fuel to it. Guide, that is indeed the most concerning part about the soul jades. There were many cultivators who thought about ways to destroy it many years ago, but this method had been lost in time. The most effective way is make it up on the spot. At this time, there should be my tools who would jump out to say they know about this. Even the guy thinks the soul jades are that concerning. It seems like only senior brother Chao G.E. knows the method to destroy the soul jades. But if I were to leak this information, will it cause a burden to him from the sheer amount of soul jades? The sense of justice from a main character. But if I were not to say anything, this world will face a calamity because of the soul jades. What should I do then? If Senior Brother Chao Ge knew about this, he will definitely understand it. Sky Senior. I know of someone who can destroy the soul jades. Good job, Xiao Yu Yu. Guide, oh? Is there really such a person existing in this world? He he that person is myself. Sky, I can swear by my name that this person truly can destroy the soul jades, but please do not blame me as I am unable to expose his identity. You you truly is my best tool. The more you hide it, the more people will get curious about it. If so, I shall let this flames burn even brighter. Guide, this is an extremely important matter you're not allowed to say nonsense since it's extremely difficult to destroy soul jades. And that method is also hard to master extremely difficult. This guy senior clearly doesn't believe it. But a chosen one, a genius like Marshall Uncle Chao Ge, it's not that hard to believe that he mastered the method to destroy the soul jades. I must speak up for him. Senior, I also know this person he speaks of, but in the same way. I am unable to expose his name. He... Chien Chien, I guess I didn't spoil you for nothing. I'll end my fanning of flames here. I'll just be peeking from now on. Let me end it with this line. Guide, if that's the case, then it's a good thing. I'll announce that I'm leaving the group chat. So you can go ahead and start chatting now. Don't disappoint me now. That baldy and the one from the demon clan. Earth, the person you two talked about, who exactly is he? Can you really not tell? It's starting, it's starting. Wind, sky no. Earth, it's not that I really want to probe. Please do not misunderstand. It's just that these few days, I've also acquired a soul jade there we go. Earth, it's just that these few days, I've also acquired a soul jade, gold, me too. That shard I found, it's still with me here. I don't know how to deal with it. Surprisingly, 
everyone have encountered that vile thing, if it continues to roam freely on this world, then it will surely cause harm to people. B. But if the fact that senior brother Chao G. E. can destroy soul jade is found out by people with bad motives, then what if? What if senior brother Chao G. E. ends up becoming a sacrifice to save the world? It's hard to fulfill both loyalty and justice. If someone really aimed to cause harm to senior brother Chao G. E. like that, I, Yu Yu, vow to defend him with my life. I will defend justice, but I will also protect senior brother Chao G. E. Sky, if any of us collect more of these soul jades, we can discuss internally for a way for you guys to pass it to me, then I can bring it to that person. Brett, you finally thought of it. Now that's a passable tool. He doesn't know just exactly how much of an internal dilemma you you went through over this. Things are going according to what I planned again. Sure leaves me in a pleasant mood. Maybe I should go stamp it with XI and Yan? As for pushing the progress for the main mission, I'll leave the mountains in three days. Comrade, I've come for stamping again. Again? How many times this time? From day to night, is that okay? Three days later. Elder Don Lee, you really aren't coming down with me? Things aren't looking good lately. It's hard for me to leave. I hate coexisting with the creature called sister-in-law. At least not being alone with her. Young Lord really aren't bringing me along? Sect leader, Xiao Qiu wants to go down to cultivate. It's not something that Xiao Qiu can handle this time around. Let's wait till you're older. By then, you can handle things alone. T then how about me? I should be big enough now, right? M.O. Sect has a lot of errand running disciples now. I need your help still. You'll take good care of M.O. Sect, right? Ah, is young lord asking for my help? How can Luo Bing possibly say no? Luo Bing will definitely not disappoint you. This venerable one will return in a few days. Xiao Qiu will definitely grow up faster. You must bring me along next time too, sect leader. Guys, look up at the sky. That's sect leader's transport tool. That's right, it's sect leader Lu. I've repeatedly watched all his clips so I can confirm it's him. Sect leader Lu hasn't left the mountains in so long. I wonder what's going on this time. It can't be that Tian Xian world has something huge happening, right? It seems like Qing Zhou will have a new whirlwind of chaos. And it's personally stirred up by our sect leader too. If possible, I hope Lord Sect Leader can stir me up too. Qing Zhou River 1, this is a river that maintains the same temperature throughout four seasons. In another words, it's a natural pool that has the perfect temperature all the time. HM Fuck, this water is hotter than it was in the previous years. Whatever, I'll choose this spot first. Since I'm already here, ugh. Wen Qing, follow me to the bottom of the riverbed. Yes, my lord. One of the twelve heavenly secret towers tower head, Wen Qing, manages all the information in Feng Yu Tower. That's right, it's another new tower head. It's been rumored that each of the twelve tower heads is a top beauty. Although not perfect, but they are all unique beauties. So if someone wants to inherit the tower head's position, they're all horny dudes. It's here. This old dude sure lives on strongly and well. He's not using them, but he refuses to let other people who are in need to take on his position either. The heavens have given me some guidance. It's to let him revive here. Green Bronze Coffin Wen Qing, do you know the person inside this coffin? Qing or naturally doesn't know. I hope Tower Head can enlighten me. Do you know Sword Sex Yu Yu? That I do know of. The perfect swordsman, the direct disciple of Sword Sovereign, whom has once been hailed the top swordsman in whole of Qing Zhou. But according to what I know, Yu Yu is still alive. Think about it. Sword Sex doesn't only have one Yu Yu. There's another person with the exactly same fame as him but has died. 
Could it be? Could it be sword sect sect leader Li Suifeng's disciple, the one who was once trained to be the next sect leader, Chen Qi? That's right. It's Li Suifeng's beloved disciple. He was the best swordsman among the younger generation before Yu Yu was discovered back then. There was even a time where rumors had it that he was being raised to be the next sword sex sect leader too. Why is the body of the sword sex beloved disciple in the hands of the tower head? Many years ago when calamity befell Qing Zhou, Chen Qi received orders to lead a group of disciples to stop it. Chen Qi killed a great number of demons that was causing trouble along the way. His name spread like wildfire because of that. However, in the last battle, Chen Qi died along with all of his comrades. At that time, Sword Sex Sect leader Li Sui Feng was in shock and anger, but Chen Qi's life lamp had gone out, his death had been confirmed, bastards. Even if you have to dig through three meters of soil, you must find and return Chen Qi's body back home. Chen Qi's life lamp, the entire Qin Zhou was in flipped over just to find Chen Qi's body. But Sword Sect could find nothing from that. It was as if Chen Qi's body had evaporated into thin air. It seems like everything was according to the Tower Head's plan. Tower Head sure is amazing to have been able to hide this from the Sword Sect and even the four legendary swordsmen. As expected of our heavenly secret tower's Tower Head. Why is the coffin turning into such a bright red color? Humph, it's normal that you don't understand it. And you use perfect, flawless body, there exist six types of aptitudes county existing. One of it is Chen Qi. Chen Qi's aptitudes was known to others as the flame god's sword body. His aptitude was the most suitable with fire. His strength is tremendous because of that. It's time. The 25th chess piece I will lay down according to the heaven's orders, it's time. Such a strong aura. This strength, it feels as horrible as though I am in hell now. Sticky, cold, dark. Those demonic energy and death aura, they are all going into the coffin. It's done. My 25th chess piece, it's been laid. Ching Zhou, Sword Sect. The life pavilion, it's where all of Sword Sect's disciples' life lamps are placed. If it's lit, it means they're alive. If it has gone out, it means they've died. Chen Qi Senior brother, the time is up. Shall we take a stroll and check the lamps? We have to check it every day. Of course that includes today too. Then, let's take a look. Although life lamps can only determine the life and death of a disciple and won't cause harm to others, it's still best to be safe. That's the sleeve of a higher up in sword sect. Nothing out of the ordinary. Let's go, senior brother. All right. The life pavilion isn't a place that any disciple can enter. A huge chaos regarding Tianxian world is currently being brewed in secret right now. We flew quite slowly throughout the entire way. But we're about to reach River One soon. There's a river below us. Marshal Uncle Lu, it's about time to eat soon. How about we catch some fishes before we move on? Marshal Aunt Jiang looks hungry too, right? Although I'm not too hungry, but it's quite nice to be able to have a taste of Chao Ji's cooking. Then let's do just that. Wah! Marshal Uncle Lo. I've called a huge green snapper. He, we're going to eat well. With Pei Qian Qian's elegance and looks, if she were to wear the uniform of a prestigious, rich young lady. I wonder how many players would become her die-hard fan. Smells so good. The most important thing when cooking fish is the fire. A little too fast, it'll be too raw. A bit too long, it'll be burnt. 
We can eat now. Fu, fu. It already smells so good from the scent. I wonder how it'll taste like. I can't wait anymore. Wow. Isn't this way too good? Marshall Uncle Lou, your cooking is too amazing. Wanna learn? Um, to be honest, not really. Ha ha ha, I only love to eat, not cook. Brave to say. Marshall Aunt Jiang should learn instead. So that when we return to the sect and she misses your cooking, she can give it a try and cook for herself. She doesn't need to. We have a promise, and we stamped on it too. Stamp? What stamping? What kind of stamp can be eaten for a lifetime? Don't understand it at all. Once we've finished investigating deeply on the situation here and nothing's going on, then I'll go back with you guys to Chun Chiu Mountain. Ah, uh, really? Doesn't that mean I can eat your delicious cooking at Chun Chiu Mountain too? Yes. Woohoo. There's so much to look forward to. But this time, we're not here to play at River One. According to my roaming on forums in my past life, the information I got for the main plot King Hades' sword, he's the first round's boss and he'll appear for the first time here. 70 to 80 people couldn't defeat even one boss? A mysterious boss appeared at River One. Lots of players passed by got killed. Is it the loss of morals or the twisted nature of human nature? It's only a rank 5. All of you are so trashy. When the boss first appeared, he was only in rank 5. But when he was struck down, he was already rank 7. Which means, if left on its own, it'll only grow much stronger. Meanwhile, a chosen one like me, what I love to do the most is, hitting him when he's the weakest. But despite saying that, the true reason of needing to rush here first thing, is because this boss has crossed paths with M.O. Sect before. His name is Chin Chi, the disciple of Sword Sect. The best swordsman before you, you. Back in the days, he was sent out to rid the chaos. A huge number of people followed him as supporters. And M.O. Sect was one of the sects that was recruited too. At that time, aside from my young parents and a super old elder, everyone was sent out. And at that time, M.O. Sect was completely wiped out. That was something that happened 30 years ago. My parents repeatedly told me how that was their lifetime's regret. Chin Chi died at that time too, which led the whole thing to close off just like that. However, how can Chin Chi come back to life? Back then, the first generation sword sovereign stirred up everything but couldn't find his body either. So many questions. There must be some secrets to this incident 30 years ago. Once I find Chin Chi, perhaps the truth will prevail. Great, the mission this time is to catch three green snappers, right? Let me show you how I can cleanly do that. Not enough money, used to doing this, does everyone remember this unlucky guy? Not enough money, level 2, from the start of the beta testing, he was jailed and finally returned to the game today. Oh ho, the water is quite warm? This time, he came to River 1 to catch fishes for a mission he accepted. At the same time, he has reached level 9 thanks to his hard work in the past few months. Huh? Catch green snappers, I guess I'll have to go into the river. She looks quite pretty, but unfortunately she's too bundled up. Since I have to catch fishes, I don't want to get my clothes wet. Since that'd be uncomfortable. Oh no. Ah, my brain is now filled with her legs. Ah. It's so hard to grasp it. Seems like if I don't get into the water, these fishes won't know my threat. Can I really watch this without paying? This swimming suit equipment is my fave. I spent a few thousand to get it. Oh no, my brain is now filled with her legs. Since she wanted to catch some fishes, how about I do it for her and we can get to know each other, and then... Ah, a life like that is so wonderful. I shall start working hard from this moment. I'll catch the fishes first. Then get to know her. Green Snappers, where are you? 
Come out quickly. Huh? Shit, oh shit. What a pervert. That guy. I must get away from that pervert quickly. She looked at me. To think she actually looked at me. How sweet. W what's going on? What just flew by? It came from below? Shall I go take a look and analyze it? Danger level, highest threat. Such a high threat level, and I can't see clearly what its shape is. Doesn't seem like an easy opponent. Should I run? You have started recording. I became a viral hit because I managed to record sect leader Lou last time. I suppose this is another chance for me to go viral again. It's merely my life. How is that more important than going viral? If I die, so be it. Note, it's not actually a dragon. It's just the spiritual light that Chen Chi left behind. Eh, my wife is amazing. She caught the fish. My wife is looking at me again. Yay. Wait, wasn't I recording the black shadow below? T that. T that is. It's a person. Mysterious boss. A red-colored boss name. To think it's a boss. I guess I'm going to be killed again. Ugh. What a familiar feeling. Damn it, I've become a hostage again. Oh no, he saw my wife. Wife, quick. Run. Where is this? What year is it? Why you fucking, you? You killed my wife. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to ruin you. You beep beep I will kill beep beep you beep beep I beep beep. Tower head, you revived him, but why are you avoiding him? You don't understand. What a perfect chess match it is. This time. Huh? What is it? Run. That's. What a bunch of nonsense. Die. He's just a beginner cultivator who doesn't know anything. If you have questions, how about asking me? That voice is. Your body must stiff from lying in the coffin for so long, right? Who are you? M.O. Sex Lu Chao G.E. Sword Heart. M.O. Sect. Sect Leader Lu, it's me, not enough money. You saved me last time too, do you remember me? That guy, it's him. My walking camera. This must be some kind of special fate, great, my walking camera is in position too. Ha, ha, ha. The tower head was able to casually revive a dead person with a pill earlier, as if a god, but why is he suddenly so terrified? We traveled so many miles away in one go. We revived the disciple of the sword sex sword sovereign. Could it be that the person who just came is the sword sex sect leader? Lu Chauga, the player against the heaven's ways. He blinded me in one eye when I took a look at him last time. I'm not afraid of you. It's just that it's not the time for us to meet yet. Furthermore, even if we're this far away, I can still observe you. Humph. I found him. How is he still alive? Marshal Ant, you know him? Yeah, but in many years ago, he has died. Ah? Uh, died? Then why is he, isn't he standing and alive right there? Could he be a ghost? The aura radiating from him isn't spiritual energy. There must be a reason. You have encountered an important character to the main plot. Would you like to receive the mission? I've wondered before too, why won't the main mission be triggered? Of course I'm accepting it. Mission details, beginner rewards. Create a huge chaos and make it known to the world that Chen Chi has been revived. Intermediate rewards. Bound Chen Chi right here for an hour. Expert rewards, kill him. Interesting, to think there are levels to the mission too. Then, let's see how strong he is first. Name, Chen Chi, character level, level 51, state. Weak friendly reminder, he contains soul jade in his body and is currently absorbing it. He's in a weakened state? 
That's great then. Who are you? M.O. Sec Sec Leader, Lu Chauga. Spiritual Wind Activated. M.O. Sect. That man is a mere third rank, there's nothing to be afraid of. But that two women behind him, their cultivation is shocking, and M.O. Sect. M.O. Sect, which sect is that exactly? I don't really remember. M.O. Sect almost got wiped out because of you. How could you not remember? Fourth level sword intent? But you're still not on par with me. Really? Wah wah. Wah. Thank you for saving my life, two beauties. But I don't have the time to admire beauties right now. It's my mission to live stream sect leader Lou's amazing display of strength. This is the power of water. Humph. It's fine if you don't remember. This venerable one will make you remember. Ignorant brat. A mere third rank and you still dare to stand in front of this venerable one? Such arrogance. It'll lead to your death. Really? Livestream viewers, 666688. Whoa, for real though, this boss is quite handsome, a head of silvery gray hair. Awesome, cool, awesome. It's just that when he stands in front of Lu Chao GE, he naturally becomes not that much of a looker. Five minutes. Give me all his information in five minutes. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Does anyone know? Can someone tell me? Who is he? Can you stop asking every time? Marshall Ant, to think that guy has the ability of fire. I've never heard of who he is, though. What is his identity? Or could he be a ghost? He died too early, so it's natural that you don't know. But you've definitely heard of his name before. He sword sex, Chin Chi. Chin Chi? Before I was born, he was already well known throughout Tian Xian for having the fire blade god body, awakening an attribute, being the disciple of the sword sect sect leader, and all that. Was it that Chin Chi? That's right. Oh shoot. I've heard of him a lot in my sect. Legends have it that he's been crazy talented since then, trained to be the next sect leader. Laughs, I'm in sword sect, I've heard of my master talking about him as well. I almost suspected my master had a crush on him. To add on, my master is a man. Speaking of which, my master used to be his disciple, does that mean I met my grand master? What are you still waiting for? Bow down to him then. Bow, my ass. He's about to get killed. Sect leader Lu looked like he's getting suppressed. Will he lose? If Chao Ji loses, I, I. That can't be. Didn't Chao Ji kill a level 50 before? Chao Ji is only third rank after all. It might still be a bit too difficult against a fifth rank. Furthermore, that guy has noticed I am a sixth rank, yet he hasn't tried to escape yet. Although I don't know what his motive is, but if he dares to harm my Chao Ge, I must kill him. Oh, is Marshall Ant going to join in? Amazing, I guess it's true that no one can touch Marshall Uncle Chao Ge. With this kind of skills, how could you address yourself as the Venerable One? Huh? As expected, even if he's in a weakened state, a fifth rank is still a fifth rank. I have to settle this as fast as possible before he gains back his strength. Since the me at level 31 isn't your opponent, then I can only. Level plus one level plus one level plus one. Breaking through on the spot? To think this brat has such a skill. The only person I know who could do this was. Lord Sword Sovereign. Chao Ji, he's breaking through on the spot. Marshal Uncle Lu, in the span of one breath, reached the peak of third rank. This is the peak of third rank. Third rank great completion. If I'm going to level up, I might as well level up to the limit. Since I still have that hundreds of thousands of experience points to use. Also, there's another thing. There will be a big mission given right before breaking through to the next level. This time, Chin Chi should be the mission target given by the system, right? Here it comes.
Doing the main mission and the level up mission at once, it's like getting two salaries with just one job. Investors sure will cry blood if they see me. Level up mission. Yellow, blue, purple, orange, of course it's orange. Kill Chin Chi. Level up mission find the hidden demonic cultivator from Purple Moon Association and kill them. Who would have thought there's a demonic cultivator hidden here? So what if you leveled up? You're still a third rank. Although there's a demonic cultivator hidden around here, but the most important mission now is to kill Chin Chi. Humph. Do you plan on stopping me with just that? You're indeed very talented, almost similar to the Sword Sovereign back then. The same kind of leveling up. At the same age. But if it was me from back then, I could have killed you in ten breaths time. I've finally seen through you. What's written on your face is full of jealousy. Nonsense. You've been hailed as a genius back then as well, yet you were never able to become the Sword Sovereign's direct disciple. I suppose that has become the reason behind your hatred now, right? I, I have such hatred. I have guessed right, haven't I? You're spouting nonsense. Breaking through nine times in one breath's time, that's indeed impressive. But the me now has an undying body. Chin Chi. You'll truly have an undying body once you reach rank seven, but for now, you are not considered undying. He's really strong, that's for sure. He's really strong, that's for sure, but I have yet to fully absorb the soul jade. And I have more important things to tend to. I don't need to waste my time on someone like him. I have an undying body, so if I want to leave, no one can stop me. Even if it's that sixth rank. Trying to run? Even if I take another hit from you, I can recover anyway. Humph, an undying body, huh? H how you could see through its exact location. Breaking through nine times in just one step, breaking through nine times in just one step, breaking through nine times in just one step? The Sword Sovereign can't level up anymore, so the person who came isn't the Sword Sovereign. Then, who is it? Who exactly is it that can make the Tower Head so terrified? No. How can he secure the location of the Soul Jade? Could he have received some kind of instructions? I wonder what kind of person is this to have breakthrough nine times and seen through the soul jade. I'm suddenly really curious. I've yet to lose. I still have backup. Yes, that's right. A chess match isn't played step by step. Your undying ability comes from this soul jade. This venerable one has seen through you. Live stream viewer 6666667 Soul Jade. Is it a crucial key item in the main plot King Hades sword? Cool, Lu Chao GE appears to really understand how that item works. Of course he does. He must 100% be the important NPC in this main mission. Nice that goes without saying. I'm still sticking to what I said before, if Lu Chao GE isn't the main NPC that supports the main plot in Tian Xian world, then I'll cut down my head for y'all to sit on. Amazing here he comes again, sharpen up your knives everyone. All your death and ghost energy and even the soul jade within your body, they're unable to escape my eyes. You no longer have an undying body. You're a bastard that should have died along my seniors from MO sec decades ago. I can kill you once more if you come to live again. Lu Chao Ji. Return the soul jade to me. The you who have lost the support of the Soul Jade truly look hideous. The bait has been set. The hidden demonic cultivator should have taken the bait by now. Soul Jade. I want the Soul Jade. I won't die if I have the Soul Jade. After losing the Soul Jade, your movements sure have gotten uglier. Just like a drug addict. 
You took the bait, finally. This venerable one has waited so long. Hey, the demonic cultivator is getting away. Mission is going to fail. How can I let you escape? Go. As for me, Lu Chao Ge's crazy fighting style, a life for a life. If your demonic beast kills me, I'll stab through you with my sword in exchange. And I still have a big hidden trick up my sleeve, my summoning spell summoning my wife. Daoist friend, are you alright? A level 41 demonic beast boss, it was killed in a second. Martial Ant Jiang is too extreme. If that hit me, I'm afraid I'd be torn into shreds. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? This icy cold sis is too strong. W who is she? Is she someone who's in a vague relationship with Lu Chao Ge? If so, then isn't his partner way too strong too? Where can we find such a strong and beautiful wife too? I want a taste of that too. That demonic beast is the invisible butterfly. No wonder the demonic cultivator could stay hidden so well. The strength is only like that of Hei Ting's. Hei Ting's ability to stay hidden is a natural one instead. Daoist friend is right. The invisible butterfly does indeed have the ability to hide all its presence, but it's incomparable to Hei Ting. Since I'm all right, I guess it's his turn now. Comrade, don't get involved. Let me do it. Demonic cultivator, Chong Jan, how exactly did he find me? I was there too when my older brother made a deal with the tower head. My older brother made me follow tower head around to see what exactly he's going to use the soul jade for and then find a chance to steal the soul jade. I didn't expect for this guy to discover me. That guy got revived by the soul jade. He must have great use to the group. We can create a huge number of him with the amount of soul jades we have. This secret is beneficial to our Purple Moon Association. I have to escape right now. Black Tail. That man in black isn't that scary. But the sixth rank woman, she's terrifying. I'll escape first and find a chance to take back the Soul Jade. The ability of water. So heavy. All the blood within my body, it's being controlled by that guy. What else do you have, 4th rank demonic cultivator? A mere 3rd rank. You have no right to detain me here. The black-tailed beast is a 4th rank demon. Being 3rd rank, it's impossible for you to withstand its black flames. Mighty rivers flow. A normal 3rd rank cultivator can't be a 4th rank demonic beast's opponent indeed. Or perhaps, even a 4th rank cultivator is impossible. However, this venerable one is anything but normal. This guy. How persistent. It's the end. Stop it. Let's leave quickly. That sixth rank woman is still around. If not for that sixth rank woman, I would have killed that bastard right away. A mere third rank, how dare you try to brag in front of this venerable one. That demonic cultivator sure is strong. He's fourth rank. Even if I use my full strength, there's no guarantee that I can take him down easily. Marshal Uncle Lu, what will you do now? So he decided to use his own blood as a sacrifice. That makes things easier. After all, if you had used some bigger tricks to escape, then my level up mission wouldn't be able to be completed. That bastard. How dare he try to give chase to this venerable despite his measly rank? Is he truly not afraid that I'll be able to kill him? If you're truly that capable, then quickly kill me off and escape. Wouldn't that be better? Damn it. I can't escape. I'll kill that annoying fly. I'll give you a taste of the huge gap between the two of us. We're a distance away from that rank 6 woman. I can kill him in one hit and then run away from ditching this beast. I'll make it. Oh no. That demonic cultivator is about to release a strong technique. 
Sick Leader Lu is in danger. It turns out a demonic cultivator is this strong. It looked like Sect Leader Lu was just tickling him. Nonsense. Sect Leader Lu was obviously playing around with him. Stop fighting. Chao Ge really looks like he's in danger. Is there anyone there who can go and help out my Chao Ge? Shut up, all of you. He's my Chao Ge. Annoying small fry. Die. Oh? Really? How dare you appear in front of me? Die under my blood explosion technique now. Blood explosion technique? Once your blood leaves your body, it's no longer under your command. This, this. This is the ability of water. The blood within your body is also a form of water. It's now under my control. Mission complete. Purple Moon Association The Altar. Chong Yan. Chong Yan. My little brother. He died. He was killed by that black sword. It's the same one that killed Asterisk Yao Yi. And the same one that killed the Red Owl too. What exactly happened? Didn't I order you to follow the people from Heavenly Secret Tower? Why did he cross paths with him? What exactly happened? Heavenly Secret Tower Head. M.O. Sex Lu Chao G.E. I want you two to die in return. Ah. No, in my chess piece, actually fall into his hands, that Lu Chao G.E. What exactly, what kind of existence is he exactly? Is that person M.O. Sex Lu Chao G.E. known for shaking up the entire Ching Zhou? I've seen his portrait just once before. It's the kind of face that you would fall harder for in your life. Wen Qing, oh, Wen Qing. How can you fall for such a good-looking appearance? But according to the information we have, that Lu Chao Ge is just a third rank. A mere third rank cultivator, is there really a need for Tower Head to run away so far? Could there be more secrets behind this? Furthermore, judging from how Tower Head is acting, it seems like that Chen Qi was killed by Lu Chao Ge. Let's go. Yes. This guy is still here. He's gotten even more violent after losing its owner. In addition, he'll immediately choose to eat his owner's body. On the other hand, he would have been eaten by his owner if he died right away at that too. Chong Yan's storage ring has a lot of treasures. I can't let him just be eaten like that. But just now, I used up all my spiritual energy in that one swing. I'm quite weak now. But, that was just a facade. Level up mission completed. Would you like to accept your rewards? Yes. Level up. Broken through fourth or rank. Demonic beast who brings chaos to the world. I shall slay you down in one swing. As expected of me at fourth rank. The demonic beast that was troubling me before was defeated in just one swing now. Other people usually go, as expected of being a fourth rank. While Lu Chao Ge goes, as expected of me at fourth rank. The worldview of an arrogant person is completely different from normal people. Next, it's to destroy all the bodies. In case some kind of ancient cultivators find the traces and try to take revenge on M.O. Sect. I know how to use Dong Li's trick as well. Chong Yan Storage Ring Our little manager, Dong Li, would be happy to see this, right? Well then, next is to settle that Chen Qi who revived from the dead. Return, the soul jade, to me. He's gone crazy, only able to repeat that one sentence. I can't get anything out of him. We've caused quite a ruckus. A lot of people are crowding here, but that's exactly what I want. I've blocked them off with spiritual energy. They can't get closed, don't worry. You can do anything you want. Thank you, Taoist friend. Still thanking me? You've worked hard. You want the soul jade? Then, let me ask you. Do you remember M.O. Sect? M.O. Sect? What M.O. Sect? 
Tell me, what exactly happened that time? Guess. Try having a guess. Do you really think I don't know? These insignificant, weak little sections, even if they all died, no one would care. Your death back then was all a farce from the start. You wanted to use the weak, little sex in your eyes, those insignificant lives to complete your secret art and to fake your death. And all of them were killed by you. And no. There's no way. How can you possibly know? You shouldn't be aware of this. No one should know. Not only do I know about it, but I also understand why you wanted to fake your death. You were trying to fulfill the goal of a traitor within the sword sect who was supporting you. Faking your death would allow you to move freely without suspicion. There's such a thing? There's a traitor within the sword sect's higher-ups? Not only that, but it's most likely not just one. They've been planning this for decades. What exactly do they hope to achieve? Based on the information I have, I'm not entirely sure. It was a complete coincidence that I stumbled upon this as well. So I have to utilize this technique from Beizhou in order to become stronger, huh, huh? The big reveal of Qing Zhou's main mission secret? The secret behind Qing Zhou's main mission. Although I'm not a player from Qing Zhou, skimming through it might shed light on my own mission. The big reveal of Qing Zhou's main mission secret. Chen Qi, the first mission's boss, grew to level 70 because no one killed him in time. The players at Qing Zhou sure suck. Qing Zhou's Sword of Hades has a story behind it. It seems like the higher-ups in the Sword Sect are trying to plot something. And Chen Qi is Sword Sect's disciple. Furthermore, his revival seemed to be closely related to the secret behind those higher-ups. While investigating at Sword Sect, I received some shocking information about Chen Qi. To stage his fake death, he mercilessly killed numerous members of smaller sections truly despicable. Oh ho, there's such a plot line too? This Qin Zhou Shur is interesting. She arrived? She's unusually fast today. What are you doing? Did you miss me? I miss you every day. What did you bring today? I have three types of silk thigh stockings for you. And your favorite cat ears and outfit. Unfortunately, Lin Ari interrupted me at that time. Otherwise, I could have gathered more information. If not for that cat costume of hers, I wouldn't have been distracted. That girl sure knows the way to a man's inner desire. What if that's the case? And what if it isn't? Look there. Do you dare to kill me, the legend from the sword sect and the disciple of the sect leader, right in front of those disciples? That guy looks like senior brother Chen Chi. He's still alive? Sect leader Lu. Please let us take charge of that person. Sword Sect will handle this. Do you see that? They've discovered me if you dare to act impulsively. Lu Chaoga, how dare you? You really dare to kill me. Take a guess. What is Sect Leader Lu doing? To think he drew his sword against Sect Leader's disciple, how could he? Stop it, Sect Leader Lu. Stop it. Sect Leader Lu, do you know what you're doing? Do you understand how determined I am now? Stop pretending. If you're really that capable, then kill me right now. Not afraid of death or even the ruining of your reputation, it seems like someone placed a restriction on your spiritual soul. Shit, he noticed. Then, let me have a look at who it was who placed a restriction on you that caused you to be this fearless. No, no, no. Chowga, someone's coming. It's a great cultivator. Ha ha ha. Lu Chowga, you won't dare to kill me. You can't take the consequences. If you do, M.O. Sex name will be removed from Tian Xian. If you dare to put your hands on me, your sect will be wiped out. I couldn't cheat my way through. Sword Heart actually can't detect someone's spiritual consciousness ability. It can only kill it. Chowga? I understand. 
Whatever decision you make, I'll stand by your side. Do you know how many people from MOSEC died because of your plans? Those people were technically my martial uncles, aunts, and even ancestors. It was also because of you that M.O. Sect suffered such severe damage back then. Such meaningless words, I don't want to listen to them. So what if they died? They're all just ants. But most importantly, there was my dad, who lived a really exhausting life. Some people don't cling to life that much. They don't bear such heavy burdens alone. But my dad was different. The further M.O. Sect fell, the more he took that upon himself. When we visited our ancestors' graves every year, my mother would take me and my little Lee's Eve back after we paid our respects. But my father chose to stay behind alone. Ancestral Hall, well, he's quite a long-winded person. He must have had a lot he couldn't finish talking about in the Ancestral Hall. Perhaps it was self-blame. He felt guilty and ashamed towards our ancestors. Stop spouting these meaningless things. Let me go right now, or you won't be able to escape when the second sword sex seniors arrive. So I don't really care what status you have. Why you really dare to kill me? Stop it. It's sixth rank, fifth heavenly layer. I'm just a son seeking revenge for his dad. Amazing damn, that felt good. Fucking satisfying. So cool. Isn't he too cool? I never liked that guy from the beginning. So arrogant. What's so great about being the direct disciple of the sword sex sect leader anyway? GG. So awesome. You're goddamn right. Lu Chao GE, number one in the world. As expected of my man. Fuck, I'm getting riled up. Ah. Brother, please kill me too, kill me. Damn. That was amazing. That's how a real man should be. Being the direct disciple of the sword sect leader? He killed him regardless. H he killed, that sect leader Lu really killed him, to think he killed the sect leader's direct disciple, so the invitation to battle back then, it was Chen Chi's plot. Our Mei Hua sect almost sent out our three seniors too. There was even a demonic beast earlier. It seems likely that Chen Chi colluded with demonic cultivators. Marshal Uncle Lu, sure is brave as hell. However, I'm starting to like this Marshal Uncle more and more now. Once we're back in Beijou, I'll give Marshal Uncle Lu an even bigger surprise. Imbecile. I told you to stop, yet you dare to do it. What a strong aura. It's the great cultivator. Xian Yin. You've just entered at the sixth rank and your cultivation is not yet stabilized. How dare you, sword sex deacon, Ching Tai. Humph. To think she's a body refining cultivator. If that's the case, even if I outrank her, I definitely can't win against her. Who are you? M.O. sect is a lower sect. How dare you involve yourself in the matters of sword sect? The Chun Chiu Mountains Jiang Xian Yan. Deacon Ching Tai was pushed back from her attack. That outfit, he must be a deacon, right? That beautiful female senior sure is strong to have made the deacon back off with just one hit. I'm so curious. What kind of relationship does she have with Lu Chao Ji? Jiang Xian Yan from Chun Chiu Mountain? If I recall correctly, she was only at fifth rank. How is she already at sixth rank? If Chun Chiu Mountain gets involved, this matter will become much more troublesome. This is a matter between Sword Sect and M.O. Sect. It has nothing to do with Chun Chiu Mountain. The four great sects are equal in status. I don't have to fear her. As long as I ensure she has no reason to get involved. I'm Chao Ji's Daoist partner. All his matters, M.O. Sect's matters, are mine as well. Partner? Partner? How can a great cultivator of sixth rank be the Taoist partner of someone as low as Lu Chao Ge, who is only at fourth rank? Huh? That must be a lie. Such a beautiful and powerful woman is sect leader Lu's partner. If it were a mutually beneficial relationship, it would make more sense. 
but still. It can't be, it can't be. Chen Qi is still a disciple of Sword Sect and the direct disciple of our sect leader. Why can't you hand him over to us for punishment when he's already restrained? And how would you handle it? We have our own rules and punishments, of course. Interesting. How different is that from what my previous life would call the relevant departments are investigating it now? Their own sect rules? So many seniors of M.O. sect died by his hand. Will some sect punishment be enough to avenge them? Humph. Young people these days, always hiding behind a woman. Xian Yin, stand beside me. That way, it won't seem like I'm hiding behind you. Okay. You. You said you were going to bring Chen Qi back to the sect for your own punishments. Well, let's discuss your sex rules and punishments together. Sword sex rules, anyone who cultivates the demonic path must be killed. Using forbidden techniques to revive oneself after death must be killed. There should still be the bodies of the people he killed under the riverbed of River He. Causing chaos and harm everywhere after dabbling in demonic cultivation must be killed if seen. Collaborating with the Purple Moon Association, attempting to conspire with outsiders, equals betraying the sect must be killed. So, please tell me which rule in sword sect states that I can't kill him? You, but, since I have done nothing to hide, why can't I kill him in front of everyone else? This venerable one has done nothing wrong. Therefore, I killed him. I left his sword behind, and it will be returned to Sword Sect to be placed in the Ancestral Hall. That is my respect for Sword Sect as the sect leader of M.O. Sect. If, if it's even worthy of entering the Ancestral Hall, you, you, you. I've heard that every Sword Sect disciple's sword has a spell attached to it, causing it to return to the Ancestral Hall the moment its owner dies, but Chen Qi's sword didn't fly back there, that means he removed that spell himself. So it seems Chen Qi no longer considers himself a disciple of Sword Sect. He's only using the sect's name to further his own plans. Chen Qi betrayed his sect, the art of cultivation, and killed his fellow comrades. What right does he have to return to the Ancestral Hall? Furthermore, he worked with demonic cultivators. How many of our comrades were killed by them? Sect leader Lu is right. Trash like him should be killed. How disgusting. To think there was still someone trying to defend Chen Qi. You wanted to silence Xian Yin using morality? Then I'll ensure you lose entirely on moral grounds. Fine. 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 As a deacon of sword sect, how could I endure such shame in Qing Zhou? This brat truly is an imbecile. Sect leader Lu, then, can you accompany me back to sword sect? Chen Qi did die in your hands. I believe you need to personally answer to our sect leader. I don't see the need for that. You. Oh no, if I don't reveal myself soon, I'm afraid Marshal Ant will kill that old timer. It wouldn't be good if Sword Sect and Chun Chiu Mountain went to war because of this. Chun Chiu Mountain Sanctus, Pei Qian Qian greets the Sword Sect Senior. I am currently traveling with Marshal Uncle Lu. Therefore, Senior, you can't take him away. Because my master, the Saint, has sent a letter requesting a meeting with Marshal Uncle Lu. The Saint? The saint who stands on equal grounds with the sword sovereign? The saint whose position is slightly higher than the sect leader? That person wants to see this brat? Is that even possible? What a smart kid. She learned to lie from me so quickly. What a great student. How annoying. Why did the saint's disciple have to show up at this moment? I can't easily bring up the sword sovereign's name here either. I'll report this matter to our sect leader as it is. Then, he'll decide what to do next. If our sect leader deliberately names you and wants to meet you, then you can't escape no matter what. Humph. But there are so many people watching us here. I've certainly lost all my dignity as of today in Qing Zhou. What Qing Tai didn't know was he had not only lost his dignity in Qing Zhou, but also in the entire world, even in the real world. Damn. He finally left. 
That old timer, how dare he try to capture our Chao Ge? Humph. What's so big deal about the sword sect? Great, who would have expected Jiang Xian Yin to become Lu Chao Ge's partner? I'm heartbroken. But why do they seem so sweet for some reason? Lu Chao Ge is still so handsome. Killing that shitty villain just like that. Right. Right. Everyone, remember that old timer's face well. Never become his disciple. Protest against that old timer, starting with me. We have a traitor in our sword sect. Although the one who was killed is from our sect, I still think that guy is super cool. Even if you want to become a villain, there's no need to mess with the chosen one, right? Many players from Sword Sect have also sided with Lu Chao Ge. Our sect leader is the coolest. Hey, isn't our sect leader always this cool? I'm used to it. As a disciple of Mo Sect, we have to be able to withstand our sect leader's random bursts of coolness at all times. Jiang Xian Yin and Lu Chao Ge became partners. I approve of this relationship. I ship them, I ship them. I'm going to ship them to the end of my life. Never stopping. We can even sacrifice Pei Qian Qian as long as it keeps them together. I can finally take a close-up shot of Lu Chao Ge again. Huh? Why am I here? Were you the one live streaming up there earlier? Quick, tell us. How does it feel to live stream on top of Lu Chao Ge's transport tool? It must have been great, right? Bring me along next time, bro. I want to get a close look at my husband too. This, is this how it feels to go viral? Amazing. Let's leave this place first. I need to find a quiet place to recover and stabilize my rank. Marshal Uncle Lu is finally acting like a normal person. Breaking through so many levels at once, if he doesn't need to recover, he'll be no different from a monster. Go into hidden cultivation? Why would I need to do that? It's only because the system rewarded me with so many things. I need to find a place to claim them all properly. There shouldn't be another fourth rank cultivator who requires the Sanctus from Chunchio Mountain and a deacon to set up a barrier for him, right? Oh well, whatever. It's all worth it since I got to taste Marshal Uncle Lu's cooking along the way. I wonder if Chao Ge's core won't be stable after breaking through so fast. That would be such a waste if it is. Marshal Aunt Jiang, are you worried about Marshal Uncle Lu? I've never seen you worried about anyone before. Yes. When it comes to worry, I've never had anyone in my heart to worry about before. Don't worry, Marshal Aunt Jiang. Marshal Uncle Lu isn't like your average person. Breaking through such a small matter. It's no big deal for him at all. Thank you. TT thank you? That ice cold Marshal Aunt Jiang is thanking me? Is this the power of love? How amazing. The power of love. Leveling up mission completed. Do you want to claim your rewards? Qing Zhou main plot mission, King Hades sword kill the boss Chen Qi 10% progress. Would you like to submit it? Killed the demonic beast, concealing butterfly, experience points 500,000. Killed the demonic beast, black tailed beast, experience points 600,000. Killed the demonic cultivator, Chong Yin, experience points 600,000. Killed the demonic cultivator, Chen Qi, experience points 1 million. Great. Just by killing all these bosses, the system gave me a total of 2700000 experience points. It's truly such a harvest leveling up 10 levels at once and my experience points also increased. Let's submit the mission progress first. That usually takes up some time to calculate. Qing Zhou main plot mission, Sword of King Hades, completion progress has surpassed 10%. Congratulations to all players for surpassing the first phase. The rewards will be distributed in 48 hours. 48 hours. As expected, it's the same as my previous life. Main plot missions involving many players and characters take more time to calculate the allocation. 
But just as Lu Chao Ge was about to submit the progress, the entire Tianxian world lit up in that moment. Qing Zhou main plot mission, Sword of King Hades, completion progress has surpassed 10%. Congratulations to all players for surpassing the first phase. The rewards will be distributed in 48 hours. What the hell? Qing Zhou main plot mission, Sword of King Hades, completion progress has surpassed 10%. Congratulations to all players for surpassing the first phase. The rewards will be distributed in 48 hours. Main plot mission, completion progress 10%. That fast? H how could that be? There wasn't any progress just yesterday. What exactly happened? This, what's going on? Did someone hack the system? Damn, am I dreaming? Completion progress 10% and it's calculating now? I know what's going on. It's sect leader Lu. Chen Qi is a cultivator who was revived from the dead. Doesn't that make him a sword of Hades? It was sect leader Lu who killed the boss. With his power alone, he helped all of us progress further in the main plot mission. Now that you mentioned it, I think there really is such a thing. Sword of Hades, does that mean a dead person revived while holding a sword? This is crazy. Sect leader Lu is even carrying the Qing Zhou players. Woohoo, players from other regions will surely be jealous of us. This is awesome, we're gaining experience points for free. As Sect leader Lu's exclusive video graft, I sure am having it easy. I'm going to get even more viral with this. It feels great to be so popular. We're depending on you, lucky bro, to continue supplying us with more of Sect Leader Lu's videos from now on. Our main character from Ching Zhou's fan cam. It depends all on you. At that moment, excitement exploded on Tian Xian World's forum as well. Ugh, I'm shaking in anger. When will other regions rise up as well? I heard a reliable rumor from Ching Zhou. Lu Chao Ge made 10% progress all by himself. Rumors also said that he's coming to Beizhou. Can he also help us with our main plot mission? Lu Chao Ge and Jiang Xian Yin became a couple. Come, come, ship them together. Sword Sex Trader, Chen Qi, we won't stand for this. Regarding Sword Sex Deacon embarrassing himself. The top 10 posts are all related to me. This is the kind of treatment befitting a chosen one like me. Main plot mission sword of Hades progress 10%, rewards are unlocking, waiting time 47 hours 45 minutes 34 seconds, unfortunately, I have to wait 2 more days to unlock the rewards. Let's claim the others first. Level up mission completed. Do you want to accept the rewards? Yes, no. For example, this orange level rank up mission. According to systems evaluation, your mission completion is S level. Rewarding you with 240,000 experience points. Great. I gained 240,000 experience points just from that. Even killing Chen Chi was only 100,000. Level up mission completion level. Do you want to accept the hidden rewards? Yes, no. As usual. There's always a hidden reward from orange level missions. A spiritual activation voucher at level 10, a copy pasting voucher at level 20, a sword intent level up voucher at level 30. Well then, what will it be at level 40? My sword heart is still at level 2 right now. Could it be, will the hidden reward give me a level up voucher for that? It shouldn't be far from that. Since that's the case, I have to get the most out of it. Let me level it up first. Leveling up Sword Heart requires 4 million experience points. Do you want to proceed? 4000000, it's not a lot anyways. Top user with high accumulation of experience points, it'll require 8000000 for the next level then. Level up. Sword Heart level 2 level up 3. Chao Ge's innate ability has broken through again. T this, Marshall Uncle Lu's innate ability. 
Pei Qian Qian's level is close to Lu Chao Ge's, so what he could see was completely different from what Xian Yan saw. It was a sense of fear from the realms of gods. So it seems Martial Uncle Lu really isn't a human. Who would choose to break through their innate ability during a time when they're supposed to stabilize their rank? Is this what stabilizing your rank means? Who breaks through again while attempting to stabilize it? Martial Aunt Jiang, what level is Martial Uncle Lu's innate ability? Level 3 3. Is that so? When I went down the mountains, I thought I'd win against him for sure. That's why I was brave enough to challenge him, even going as far as starting my bets, yet now. Martial Aunt Jiang, if I were to challenge him again now, do you think I would be weaker or stronger? If you don't use that hidden trick up your sleeve, maybe you won't be able to match him anymore. After all, you are the saint's disciple with great talent. If it was any normal fourth rank cultivator, I'd remove the word maybe. What if I used that hidden trick then? Qian Qian, the saint should have warned you before. Unless it's an extreme situation, you must not use that tactic in case it backfires. I know, I know. I'm only asking. Marshal Aunt Jiang, does Marshal Uncle Lu have any hidden tactics or secrets that I haven't seen yet? Tell me in secret if you know. I don't. Ah, you two are partners who sleep together. How could you not know any secrets? W. Watch sleep together. Such nonsense. Ah, you, he, you two. I shouldn't have said what shouldn't be said. Chow G.E. has never forced me in any way for this, but I don't know whether if he wants it or not. Is he really looking forward to that day as well? Unfortunately, at this moment, Chao Ge was unaware of Xian Yan's thoughts as he focused on breaking through innate ability, Sword Heart, level 2 to level 3. So this is what the level 3 of Sword Heart feels like. From now onwards, any spiritual things under third rank can be instantly destroyed by this venerable one. Would you like to receive the rewards for the orange level mission? Yes, no, if my guess is correct. It should be a level up voucher for the sword heart skill. That means I would save around 8 million experience points. Furthermore, yes. If I really do get the voucher and level it up to level 4. This venerable can kill spiritual beings up to 4th rank in one shot from now on. Just thinking about it feels amazing. Innate ability level up voucher can only be used in your current level. Do you want to use it? Yes, no. As I expected. My swordsmanship talent only has four points, so this time it's the limit for raising my innate ability level for now. Forcefully pushing these eyes of mine to the limit, I didn't expect it to be this painful. It's fortunate that I've been cultivating that painful technique all these years. Phew, it's finally over. This pair of beautiful eyes of mine hurts so much it feels like it's going to explode. Fortunately, I'm the chosen one. If it's someone else, they wouldn't be able to handle it. But I'm quite curious. What can I see now that I couldn't see before? Let's try it. What an intense, strong spiritual impact. Chao Ge's innate ability has broken through yet again in such a short time. Ugh, it feels so painful. Martial Uncle Lu's innate ability is so strong. Qian Qian, stabilize your mind. Okay. No, this doesn't feel right. Chao Ge is usually aware of his limits. Why would he unleash his full power without considering the people around him? What exactly is happening inside? W what is this? What are you? How dare you lay a hand on this venerable one? It burns. Ugh. Damn it. Bragging that you have so many pairs of hands, is it? Let's see who has more. It's gone. What was that thing just now? I've never seen something like that in my previous life. Players in the forum wouldn't have heard of it either. Could it be related to my sword heart ability? 
the higher the level I break through, the more I can perceive compared than ordinary? Although I don't know what it is, I can confirm that it truly exists. Perhaps, Tianxian World isn't just a simple game. Back then, Tianxian World became viral worldwide without any marketing strategy, corporate backing, or advertising. It was all thanks to word of mouth from the players. Despite its immense popularity, it seems that no one knew its origins either. I understand now. It seems that this world was meant for me, Lu Chao Ge, right from the start. Spiritual wind, activated, this is a world meant for me, the chosen one. An arrogant and self-centered person's thoughts have begun. It truly is unpredictable. It's about time for me to bask in their admiring gazes. As for that giant eyeball I saw earlier, if I come across it again, I'll definitely rip off a few tentacles to investigate what it is. Heavenly Secret Tower Tower Lord, why did that thing become like that? Didn't you use that to revive Chen Chi? Chen Chi died. That Lu Chao Ge actually went ahead and killed him. If he had handed Chen Chi over to the sword sect, I would have been able to manipulate my people within to guide him back onto the path set by the heavens. Yet, that Lu Chao Ge was so brave and chose to kill the disciple of sword sect leader just like that. How arrogant. Chen Chi is still the disciple of the sword sect's leader. Now that Lu Chao Ge has killed him, he will have to face the sword sex leader's wrath. Just wait. You will pay for ruining my plans. Wen Qing, has Yu Rou replied to you? Lord Yu Rou has sent a message. What you requested has been prepared. All that's left is for you to head towards Beizhou. Yu Rou is one of the twelve beauties and lords of the heavenly secret tower and is in charge of affairs in Beizhou. Okay. Supervise the sword sect carefully and immediately report to me as soon as there's any news about Lu Chao Ge. Yes. Humph. Lu Chao Ge. Be prepared to face the consequences for the mess you've caused. What happened? The bell rang nine times. That's the signal for all the higher ups to gather. How long has it been since there was an emergency summons like this in our sect? What exactly happened? Sword Sect Meeting Hall. What exactly happened for us to be summoned like this? I don't know either. I rushed over as soon as I heard the bell. Uh, hey. You, get up. V Vice Sect Leader. Vice Sect Leader, you're sitting in my seat. I. You, go sit over there. Ah, uh, that. Ha uh, would you believe me if I said I was forced? How troublesome. I wonder what this is about. A summon like this doesn't require my senior brother, so why do they need me? Just give it a listen. It probably doesn't concern us anyway. That's true. Once this is done, do you want to come with me and stay a few days at M.O. Sect? I want to give some guidance to little Dongli. Of course. Since I'm going, I can't go empty-handed. According to Chauvis' cultivation speed, he should be halfway through third rank now, right? Then I can give him a breakthrough pill. Everyone. Sect leader is here. His usual cheerful self is gone. Why is his expression so somber? Junior brother Chen, come and explain the situation. Everyone, this sword belongs to Chen Chi. And today, Chen Chi has returned from the dead. Revived from the dead? How could that happen? Junior brother Chen, don't spout such nonsense. Humph, don't get so worked up, everyone. Things are more complicated than you think. Chen Chi not only came back to life, but also delved into the arts of demonic cultivation. How did he get revived, though? It was the Soul Jade. Soul Jade. Another soul jade has made its appearance. Where did that brat go then? Why is his sword back here? Chen Chi was killed. He was killed by M.O. Sex Lu Chao Ge. Senior Brother Chen, don't just say such ridiculous nonsense. 
M06 Lu Chao GE have only just entered third rank, how could he kill Chen Qi who's in fifth rank? Chun Chiu Mountains Jiang Xian Yin and Sanctress Pei Qian Qian were there too. And there were many other witnesses at River He. They can all testify this. Furthermore, Junior Sister Ning, you've mistaken one more thing. According to my disciples' report, while Lu Chao GE was killing Chen Qi, he broke through nine levels and reached the peak of rank three. Nine levels in one go. What kind of genius is that Lu Chao GE? Chao Ji is amazing. Oh ho, as expected of Ji Chang Kong's half disciple. Anything else? Vice sect leader, what do you mean? Is there anything else related to Lu Chao Ji? How did he kill Chen Chi? A fourth rank killing a fifth rank, don't you think that's too unrealistic? There is. After that, another demonic beast appeared, and Lu Chao Ji rose to fourth rank after killing it on his own. Fourth rank? Wait, let me confirm some things. Lu Chao Ge went up nine levels in one go, reaching the peak of third rank, and then became fourth rank after taking on a demonic beast all by himself. Did both of these things happen at the same time? Yes. That brat, what talent. Chao Ge, you're truly becoming more and more amazing by the day. Chao Ji's progress has surpassed my senior brother when he was his age. That also means Chao Ji has exceeded senior brother. And as his indirect master. That also means I far, far exceeded senior brother. Once the meeting ends, I'm going to tell my senior brother right away. I still can't leave now, since. The people at Sword Sect are trying to provoke my indirect disciple. Let's see who dares to do so while I'm sitting here. Everyone, please calm down first. After Lu Chao Ge killed the demonic beast, he captured Chen Qi. When I arrived there, Chen Qi had already lost one arm. He was covered in wounds and clearly unable to fight. Oh no, Chen Qi and the sect leader's relationship is not just a simple master-disciple one. Back then, it was the sect leader himself who found Chen Qi as an abandoned baby. Whose baby is this? I do not know either. He was abandoned by someone in the mountains, so I picked him up. Look at his face. Doesn't he resemble your younger brother? I do think there is some resemblance. How about letting him take on my surname, Chen? That would be great. Since he's an abandoned child, let's call him. Chen Chi. Chen Chi, cheer, grow up well and healthy. Chen Qi takes on the surname of the sect leader's deceased wife. Although they are master and disciple by name, they're actually as close as father and son. If no one stands up for Chao Ge today, I'm afraid the entire M.O. sect will suffer the wrath of the sect leader. M.O. sect is, after all, just one of the 300 lower sects, and it's in the bottom hundred. Senior brother Chen, based on what you said, Chen Qi was heavily injured but not dead at that time, right? Exactly. Lu Chao Ge delivered the killing blow right after I arrived at River He and told him not to do it. This is clearly disrespectful towards us, the sword sect. Killing someone from our sect in front of our deacon. How dare he? With his personality, there truly is some grudges between M.O. sect and Chen Chi. He still remembers that. Good job, kid. You're becoming more and more like me when I was younger. Such pride you have, never bowing down to anyone else. He clearly has no respect for us. Exactly. If we leave this as is, what would happen to our reputation? He's clearly challenging Sword Sex position. Who does Lu Chao Ge think he is? All right, all right. Keep on cursing. I'll definitely remember each of your faces. No, we can't let this completely lean against Chao Ge. Junior Brother Chain, did Lu Chao Ge say anything to you after that? It can't be that you two met but did not exchange any words, right? We did. He shared everything Chao Ge said to everyone here, word by word. You said you were going to bring Chen Qi back to the sect for your own punishments. Well, let's discuss your sex rules and punishments together. 
Sword sex rules, anyone who cultivates the demonic path must be killed. Using forbidden techniques to revive oneself after death must be killed. There should still be the bodies of the people he killed under the riverbed of River He. Causing chaos and harm everywhere after dabbling in demonic cultivation must be killed if seen. Collaborating with the Purple Moon Association, attempting to conspire with outsiders, equals betraying the sect must be killed. So, please tell me which rule in sword sect states that I can't kill him? Such a killer line. His charisma is off the charts. This guy has the true attitude of a cultivator in our era. Chun Chiu Mountain's deacon, Jiang Xian Yin and the Saintus, Pei Qian Qian also showed intentions to help Lu Chao Ge. That's the reason I was unable to capture him and bring him back here. Why are people from Chun Chiu Mountain involved too? This has made the matter much more complicated, but this matter, it really looks like our sect dabbled into demonic arts. Everyone, it seems like all of you have come to a certain extent of understanding. Share your thoughts. How should we handle this matter? Although Lu Chao Ge is right on every aspect, but he still did kill the sect leader's disciple. How could we just share our thoughts like that? It might bring trouble to ourselves. Junior Brother Chain, you are the one who was there. What do you think? This matter is quite complicated. It's hard to take a stance, but there is one thing that's clear. That Lu Chao Ge do not have a single shred of respect for us, the sword sect. This is not a matter of who's right or wrong. It's an attitude problem. Lu Chao Ge, you humiliated me in front of so many people. Don't think I'll just let you off so easily. How about you guys? Junior brother is right. Let's put everything else aside for now. Disrespecting us is something we can't ignore. Mo6 Lu Chao Ge is too arrogant. He isn't aware of his position at all. To have disrespected us, then we naturally have to deal with it using our sect rules. You guys. All right. It seems we've reached the same conclusion. We shall carry out our sex punishment towards Lu Chao Ge. Why did no one ask the opinion of me, the vice sect leader? Do you guys see me as dead? The vice sect leader usually just attends for the sake of it. Why is he, usually, he's desperate for all of us to reach a conclusion, so why is he standing up for a lower hundred sect today? The vice sect leader is the strongest after the sword sovereign in our sect. Even the sect leader has to show him some respect. Vice sect leader and sect leader, they are two of the four legendary swordsmen. Aside from the sword sovereign, the two of them hold the highest position in the sect. If these two were to draw swords and fight, sword sect would fall into a mess. Sai, Senior Brother G, as it's an emergency meeting, of course, everyone has to listen to what you have to say as the vice sect leader. However, before that, may I share my thoughts for you to consider first? Go ahead. My disciple, Chen Chi fell into the path of demonic cultivation. As the sword sect sect leader, I will take responsibility and write a reflection letter tomorrow. As for Chen Chi's death, it was a rightful death. Not just him, every person involved in demonic cultivation and the organization must be harshly punished without discrimination. Why is the sect leader acting like this? Huh? Shouldn't he be angry at that small MO sect and punish them? This is completely different from what I imagined a tight bond between master and disciple to be like. Junior Brother Chain, please clarify first if this matter is related to the Purple Moon Association? Yes. Then, we shall carry out the fourth attack on the Purple Moon Association. Li Suifeng's voice was very soft, but that one sentence will trigger a bloody war between justice and injustice in Qing Zhou. MO6 Lu Chao Ge managed to defend against and eliminate a demonic cultivator. According to our sect rules, he deserves to be rewarded. Senior Brother G, aside from this, do you have anything else to share or add? Let's just do that. I have no opinions. 
All right, then the meeting is adjourned. Sect leader's back. Looked like it has aged a bit more. Earlier then, thanks a lot, Senior Brother G. Little Li Z is my disciple. Chao G E is my indirect disciple too. We're all on the same side. No need to thank me. I'm not going to talk anymore for now. I must immediately go tell my senior brother about Chao G E rising in nine levels in one go. Senior brother G is still always in such a rush. However, Although the matter this time has been resolved, I still feel like the chaos surrounding Chao Ge has just started to be triggered. Let me go and visit Mo Sect for a bit. If a storm is coming, let Aunt Ning help block some of it for you guys. Sword Sect's Nameless Peak Black Bamboo Forest, Senior Brother. Come out quickly and meet your junior brother. There's really great news I must share with you today. Junior Brother, what is this about for you to be so impatient? My indirect disciple, Lu Chao Ge, leveled up by nine levels in one go. Hey, he's stronger than you at your age. Hey, your direct disciple has been left far behind by mine. Hey, that truly is great news. You've taken in a great disciple, junior brother. That's all? Humph. There's more about my Chao Ge for you to be shocked about. Humph. Senior brother, why aren't you asking me how he did it? You'd be shocked to hear it. Right, right. Junior brother, you must be thirsty from speaking too much, right? Chao Ge fought against a fifth rank who revived from the dead as a third rank himself. He then broke through on the spot. And he even killed Chen Chi who fell into demonic cultivation in front of that old brat. Chin Tai. Oh, tell me more. Humph. Finally impressed by my disciple, huh? And still pretending like you don't care. Ji Chang Kong then told the Sword Sovereign everything that happened today in detail, from the emergency meeting, Chen Chi falling into demonic art, to Li Sui Fong even wanting to reward Lu Chao Ge. How is it? Wouldn't you say this disciple of mine truly shocked the heavens? Sai, it's about to rain. Speak like a human. All right, all right. As for Lu Chao Ge, who shook up the entire Qing Zhou, what is he up to now? Marshal Uncle Lu, are you really not spending more time stabilizing your realm? It's fine. Spiritual wind activated. This aura, his realm is indeed extremely stable. He managed to stabilize it so much in such a short time. His every move has the power of a fourth rank. It's indeed solidified. That's right. The person who stirred up the entire Ching Zhou is currently showing off in front of these girls. Since Marshal Uncle Lu's realm is so stable already, why don't we head to Beijou now? I'm already looking forward to seeing Chun Chiu Mountain sect leader and the extremely talented genius, Marshal Uncle Lu fighting over Marshal Aunt Jiang. And now? Ah. Chao Ge must be thinking of the rumors about the sect leader and I being in a vague relationship. Let's go. I'll accompany you back to your sect. The way he's holding my hand so tightly, is he trying to show his determination? The main plot mission at Ching Zhou will start in only one or two days. It'd be perfect to use that time to rush to Beizhou. Furthermore, I've already taken advantage of Beizhou's main plot mission. Since I was a player in the Beizhou region in my past life, so the main plot mission. I'm super familiar with it. Marshal Aunt Jiang, let me tell you. That store clerk was so funny when I went there the last time. To think she tried recommending me anti-aging products. Cultivators like us generally age slower, so she really was trying to scam you. On the way to Beijou. News and updates from noob players always spread the fastest. There's also the fact that I killed Chen Chi, so I'm sure the sword sect should have already reacted by now. Here it is. Shocking. To think the sword sex sect leader is someone like this. He would actually do something like that. Isn't that such a vulgar, crappy way of titling your articles in the past? Why are people still doing it now? How annoying. I see. 
It's more or less as I expected. Lee Sui Fong will be sharing a reflection letter this afternoon. He even personally snapped Chen Qi's sword in half. This shows that he has rejected Chen Qi's identity as a disciple of the sword sect. He wants to reward me according to the sect rules even though I killed his beloved disciple. A prominent figure like him sure has things to uphold. That's all? No more? How strange, they didn't even conduct any investigation within their sect? With Li Sui Fong and the higher ups at sword sect, Considering its capabilities, they can't possibly not realize there's something wrong within the sect, right? Or could it be, something as humiliating as this, they are actually planning on resolving it in private? Forget it. I've already managed to settle Chen Chi. That alone is a good start. This time, there'll be less people dying in Qing Zhou. In my past life, every main plot, the boss in each region ended so many lives. Ching Zhou wasn't an exception either. Snow. You've left Ching Zhou and entered Beizhou. There are all kinds of strange sights in this world, and Beizhou only has winter and summer. Whoa, Beizhou. I'm home. Beizhou. To the northern end of the Tianxian world lies Beizhou. It is not known whether it's related to its geographic location or unknown mysteries, but Beizhou's days are half hot and half cold. Chunqiu Mountain, and perhaps, to compensate for what Beizhou lacks, there's a great sect on this land named as the Chunqiu Mountain. How familiar. I was part of Beizhou in my past life too. Due to a bunch of coincidences, I've traveled thousands of miles to get here. I was even the disciple of Jiang Xian Yin then, something all players could only have dream of. And now, it's just like back then. The same Beizhou, the same female company. The only difference is, my loyalty has grown even more. Marshal Uncle Lu. Marshal Uncle Lu. Beizhou is my turf. I can be your tour guide. For free too. How do you want to have fun? Do you want to go straight to Chunchio Mountain or do we go play first? Well, if there's anywhere that interests me, we can go take a look. Sure, count on me. I may appear to be having fun, but the truth is, I'm going to get involved in the main plot mission. This is truly a flawless plan. As a Beijing player in my past life, I'm more familiar with the main plot mission. The first stage's boss, I wonder if I'll encounter it. If it were to grow, it would become a high-level boss like Chen Qi, a level 70. System, open the main plot mission for Beizhou. Beizhou's main plot mission, the calling of all spirits. Beizhou's main plot mission, the gathering of evil spirits. Mission info, find the first strong demonic beast that was revived. Scope, within Beizhou current progress, 2.9%. 2.9%, those noobs really tried their best. And if I were to solve Beizhou's main plot mission, then there should also be that villain group in Beizhou. Similar to Ching Zhou's Purple Moon Association, they are known as Yellow River Association. Comparing their capabilities, the Yellow River Association is more or less the same. But in terms of beliefs and motivation, it's definitely not on the same level. Purple Moon Association is after the heart of Emperor Qing, raw, intense power. While the Yellow River Association's ambition is the destruction of the world. Their association is filled with crazy extremists. They believe that the world itself has a problem and wish to construct a whole new world. What are they on about? Do they think it can be changed that easily? What a stupid farce. Somewhere in Beijing Ice Plains. The tower head's expression and mood aren't at their best lately. I wonder what's bothering him. One of the twelve tower heads of the heavenly secret tower, you row. We're here. There's nothing around here, though. What did the tower head find? What is the tower head planning to do? He can't be trying to kill himself on these ice planes, right? So it's a barrier. Euro, come in. Yes. This feels weird. What a tight space. 
This definitely isn't in the ice planes. How cold? With my fourth rank strength, I shouldn't be able to feel the cold, but why is it so cold here? Activate your spiritual power to fend yourself against the cold right away. If it enters your body, you'll die without a word. Tower head, how much longer do we need to dive? We're here. Enter that cave. Yes. T that is. Pass me what I told you to prepare. Tower head, the things you've asked me to prepare, they are all in here. Okay. Now, I will once again move the chess pieces planted by the heavens. The soul jade was obtained through an exchange with the Yellow River Association. But that eyeball, what is it? It entered? That is, ice wolves the most commonly seen demonic beast on the ice plains. Tower head, those demonic beasts are gathering. Don't worry. Allow it to choose, let it filter through. Success. This is the first mountain peak in Beijou, the North Peak. Marshal Uncle Lu, the view is gorgeous, right? Yes, it's indeed beautiful. An endless sea of clouds, seemingly like there are no ends. Right, right. When I get tired from cultivating, I like coming here the most. Qing Zhou main plot mission, first phase, calculation time. 10. The view is beautiful, but what's even better is the reward calculation time for the main plot mission is almost done. Almost 80% was contributed by myself solely. Considering the level of contribution, I wonder what the system will give me this time. Qing Zhou main plot mission, first phase, calculation time, 1. 1. Not only Lu Chao GE, the entire Qing Zhou's players are also watching this countdown. This is a huge reward event for all players who are involved in the main plot mission. Qing Zhou main plot mission, first phase, has been calculated. Qing Zhou players have earned 100,000 experience. Woohoo! Tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands. So many experience points. I can level up a lot. Let's go. How amazing this is. It sure is great to have a power player on our server. All hail sect leader Lu. He's the coolest. Huh, I didn't do anything and I got these too? TSK. That reward is given to every player in Qing Zhou equally, regardless of whether you are involved or not. Furthermore, just a mere 100,000 experience points is nothing to me anymore. Qing Zhou main plot mission, first phase, has been calculated. Contribution reward. Here it is. This is what I've been expecting. Your contribution to the Qing Zhou main plot mission is amazing. You've been rewarded 8 million experience points. That's all? It seems like the rewards from the first phase are only experience points. That too it's only a few million points. The first phase sure is boring. Your contribution to the Qing Zhou main plot mission is amazing. You will receive random attribute pulls x8. Wait, what is this? Random attribute gotcha pulls x8? I've hit the jackpot. I take back what I said. The first phase is amazing. Come to me. Random attribute pulls, processing. Let's pull five first. My luck is 3.1415926. With that number, I should pull something great, right? Spear Mastery X1, Spear Mastery? I'm a sword cultivator now. What use do I have for that? Where can I even utilize it? Staff Mastery X1, this shitty system. It's not hinting me at something else, right? Gun? Staff? Is it trying to tell me to do the deed already? Concealment X1, Concealment X1, not bad. It's two purple ones. 
and their concealment. Hei Ting's concealment should be at 10 points max. This is something really handy for assassins. There's still the last one. Could it be an orange one? Physique X1. Physique is quite important, but I'm not a freaking tank. It's not important and... There's only three more. I don't believe there won't be an orange one. Since it's gambling anyway, might as well go all out. I dare you to not give me a single orange. Orange one. Finally it came out. Let's open the blue ones first. Spiritual strength plus one. Spiritual strength plus one. To think these two are spiritual strength upgrades. This perfectly complements my innate ability, the sword heart. Even if the other ones were trash, just these two have given me back what I lost. My innate ability basically ignores any physical strain or attacks towards my spiritual sense. The stronger my spiritual strength, the higher the cultivation levels I can slay. As a 4th rank cultivator, slaying 5th rank cultivators is not impossible for me now. The last orange one, what kind of surprise will you give me? Marshal Uncle Lou has not spoken a single word since earlier. Is he really just admiring the clouds? I'm suddenly a little curious. For an orange level attribute, to think this is what it gave me. It's known as the most useless orange level attribute. Heaven and Earth Attachment plus one, the reason all players label it as useless is because there are requirements to using it. First, you must be a cultivator with the ability of Heaven and Earth and the ability of heaven and earth that can't be leveled up after its original level should have been consolidated and activated. However, this venerable one is coincidentally one with such ability. So this is a treasure to me. Attributes, utilize. Huh? He's really breaking through. Marshal Uncle Lou actually got enlightened from just watching the sky and the clouds? Such talent? Isn't this inhuman? Let's try what I just learned. Cloud, come. Even if there's only one droplet of water, I can still rile it up and make it stir. HM, let's stop playing around. Sword. Marshal Uncle Lou can mobilize the ability of heaven and earth to this extent. Isn't this what only those great cultivators can do after ranking up? Marshal Uncle Lou, is it even possible for the ability of heaven and earth to be upgraded still? Why not? But the history books never recorded something like that. That can only mean that the people before us weren't able to achieve that. That can only mean that the people before us weren't able to achieve that. That can only mean that the people before us weren't able to achieve that. That can only mean that the people before us weren't able to achieve that. A hint related to Beijo's main plot mission, The Gathering of Evil Spirits, has appeared before you. A hint related to Beijo's main plot mission, The Gathering of Evil Spirits, has appeared before you. Ho! Oh. System, you're finally doing something good for me. I seem to detect a bit of death and demonic aura. I'll go ahead and investigate. You two can follow after me. Since I gained free information, I'll just rip off the system. Death and demonic aura? Even I couldn't detect it. Hurry, hurry. Marshal Ant Jiang, let's quickly follow after him. What the fuck? This feels like we're running away as if crazy wild dogs are chasing us. Wild dogs? You're calling these two meter tall things, wild dogs? These ice wolves suddenly went violent. And did you not hear that beast-like roar they let out earlier? Bro, the wolf behind you its breath is almost tickling your ass already. We came here only to hunt down ice wolves that left their pack. How did we end up triggering a pack of angry ice wolves? I'm done for. I only have one last revival coin. If I use that up, I'll have to delete my account and start over. Buff, Roar of the Great Ancestor. I'm doomed. It's truly gone wild. Huh? This shadow is coming from the sky? 
What a huge sword. Such a huge sword, this must be a really strong cultivator. There's a live streamer called Not Enough Money went viral from live streaming. Even if I die today, I'm definitely live streaming it today. Everyone, feel free to send hearts. I'm about to live stream a strong cultivator demolishing a bunch of small fry ice wolves. It was only moments ago when he was crying for help over these ice wolves, but now they are only small fries. What a handsome man, even though I'm a man, I think he's really hot too. Wait, this face, why does he look so familiar? 666, ah, uh, this feels great. He's so cool, he's too cool. So arrogant, what's so special about the disciple of the sword sex sect leader anyways? Lu Chao GE, number one in the world. As expected of my man. Damn, I'm getting riled up. Isn't this the money not enough live streamers stream, the person who killed the red named Big Boss? Could it be, it's finally my turn to go viral too? Everyone. Quickly, look who this is. It's M.O. Sex Sect Leader, Lu Chao G.E. He really came to Beijing. Lu Chao G.E. Holy shit. Is this real? Really came to Beijing? Ah. My husband is still so handsome. Live streamer, please aim directly at my handsome sir, Chao G.E. Glad I tuned in early. My husband is so hot. Selling advertisement spots here. What is he doing? Is he unleashing some big technique again? Wah. My husband got hotter. My husband's so hot. Quickly, zoom out. I want to see his technique. A group of ice wolves. Just right for me to test some things out. Go. Six sixty six. What's going on? What exactly happened? I can't see clearly. This useless live streamer. Don't you think this blurriness adds to the mystery? Look, that seems to be my husband. Stop spouting nonsense. That's clearly my husband. Ah, he's even more handsome in this mist. Here he comes. My husband. Can you keep these stupid comments under control? How boring. They seem so terrifying at first glance, but their experience points are so little that it's sad to even see. Or is it because I've been earning too many points that they seem so little in comparison? Experience points plus 2,000, experience points plus 2,000, experience points plus 2,000. Buff, Ancestors Roar. Ancestors roar, so you guys actually have a buff strengthening you guys. Then, from the looks of things, Beijo's main plot mission's first boss is the ancient beast Moonlight Snow Wolf King. He has awoken. In my previous life, I formed a group of 50 people above level 50 to kill the Snow Wolf King that had fully developed. Level 74 Moonlight Snow Wolf King, danger level, life threatening. I wanted to see how 50 players at level 50 and above would fare against the Wolf King if we could easily defeat him. However, it ended with everyone getting wiped out. At that time, I had to spend all my revival coins. This guy is truly monstrous after it has fully developed. It was only after Pei Qian Qian, who was 6th rank at that time, appeared and under her lead, Beijo players managed to kill the first stage boss. That was also how Pei Qian Qian's main character identity was officially verified in the game. I have to drag that guy out. That Wolf King should be around Chen Qi's level now, just over level 50. With my current ability, I can still defeat him. Let's settle it quickly then. He's so hot no matter what he does. That pose, is he going to unleash some new technique? New technique. Will my husband have new techniques at night too? Sword Heart Activated Is this the legendary an army of thousand back away from one person in white robes you're quite cultured, but the right way to say this is black robes? I found him. 
These group of ice wolves who received a buff from the Wolf King, they're exposing his location. The other use of the sword heart is to see through the spiritual connection between demonic beasts. Wolf King, you can't escape now. Since I've found the Wolf King's location, I have no more use for you guys to be left alive. How cool. How did he do that? My husband didn't even unsheath his sword. He's such a big bro. I want to become a man like him too. I've decided to become Lu Chao Ge's man. Slaying souls mentally, I only need a glance of their souls to kill them on the spot. As for their bodies falling, it's only natural for the flesh. He got angered, huh? How noisy. Ha. Huh. Ha, huh. how dangerous. I almost had to use another revival coin, even though it was only a roar. An earthquake? An avalanche. It's not an earthquake, nor an avalanche. It's the ice wolves. S so many ice wolves. This amount, I'm afraid it's over 500. We need at least hundreds of people to counter this many ice wolves. Huh? Why, why isn't he afraid? This amount of demonic beasts. That's right, he's the renowned sect leader Lu who's the strongest in Qing Zhou after all. Why should I be afraid? Even if I die. That means I'm dying alongside Lu Chao Ge. This is truly. He, the hard to turn away from. 2,000 experience points each. Then wouldn't this be 1 million experience points altogether here? And what a perfect chance for me to try the ability of water since it got powered up. Time stopped? No, it's only the snowflakes that stopped falling. Spiritual wind activated. Hmm, this wind is pretty great. As expected of me. Now, go. The wind belongs to the heavens. I borrowed it to cause a gust, but ultimately caused a fire in the earth. Such beautiful violence. OMG, OMG, OMG. Such beautiful violence. This, this is simply the legendary immortal. Marshall Uncle Lou's control over the power of heaven and earth, it's absolutely precise. If it was me, I could definitely never achieve such a feat even with that power. I finished the appetizers. Chow Ge, did you notice anything strange? These ice wolves are just an appetizer. The true main dish is still to be served. And that main dish is within that blizzard. Let's go. Follow me to take a look. MHM. This is too shocking. The real Lu Chow Ge is even more exaggerated than what the forum said. What are you frozen there for? Hurry up and move those useless legs of yours and chase after him. Can't you be more aware as a cameraman? I'm sorry, not enough money I shouldn't have called you trash last time. You turned out to be really amazing in comparison. Not enough money, thank you. Hurry up and chase after him. Hurry. Go. That's right. Even if I were to die. I have to finish streaming this today. How many chances like this would I get? If not now, when else? Lu Chao Ge really came to Beizhou. He killed countless ice wolves in just a glance. It's finally our turn, Beizhou. It's true. The main plot mission progress just went up by 0.2%. Great. Today's such a great day. Everything we wish for is finally coming true. Go, go, go sect leader low. Make more progress for us in Beijing, please. Let's go. The stupid players are still watching the live stream on the forum. But the smart ones are already heading to the ice plains. Tian Xian, login. Loading in progress. Loading complete, login successful. Why are there so many people? What the fuck? 
Didn't you sell your account already? I bought it back with a high price. It's worth it for Sect Leader Lu. Hurry, let's go find Sect Leader Lu now. We can gain a lot from just harvesting the corpses and remains of what he killed. Let's go. The girls in Beizhou are the best. Sect Leader Lu is considered as Beizhou's son-in-law after all. So he counts as someone from Beizhou too. That's right, that's right. The girls from other regions aren't as great. Look at ours. The transformation is complete. This is the Moonlight Ice Wolf King. But why isn't he moving at all? He requires fresh blood to awaken. Fresh blood, I don't think I've prepared any of that. You did. It's in your body. So he wants to use me to. H, how can I give my blood to it? Press your hand against his third eye. That third eye can absorb blood too? If I don't do as I am told, I'm afraid I'd be killed and drained dry anyways. I have no choice. Oh no, this is bad. I'll really be sucked dry if this goes on. Oh no, I'm doomed. Return. Let's go. This chess piece has been placed and activated. The rest will depend on itself. T thanks, tower head. Huh? Power of water. This is Lu Chao Ji's trace. It's him. It's him again. No. I can't leave the Ice Wolf King here. Or he's going to kill it too. What is the tower head so afraid of? Go back. We need to take the Ice Wolf King along. Can we really take such a terrifying creature back with us? You beast. Settle down. Tower head, someone's coming in. This aura, this venerable one is very familiar with it. Someone's hiding here. It's his voice. Let's go. Ah. Trying to escape? Xian Yin, were you able to see the faces of those two people? Only one of them. A woman. She seemed to have lost a lot of blood and her foot was injured badly. As for her expression. It's hard to describe. If Lu Chao Ji saw it too, he would know what that expression meant. It clearly was a miserable one. Is there any other description? I think that woman looks familiar. But I can't recall it clearly for now. That's good enough. We'll eventually run into them again one day. The person manipulating all of these from behind the scenes, if we can dig up his traces, that's good enough. Whether or not we kill them, it'll depend on if he's worth it. The Moonlight Ice Wolf King A legendary beast who is said to have been a fourth rank right from birth. A terrifying existence with monstrous strength. Fourth rank at birth. Damn it. With my efforts of cultivating for so many years, only did I reach that rank. Somehow that makes me mad. Such a high rank, monstrous beast. If he consumes enough of other beasts, there's a high chance it'll grow into not just 7th rank, but even 8th rank is possible. The legends say that there used to be a 8th rank Moonlight Ice Wolf King. With just one slash, it destroyed a big sect in one go. But, a beast like this, shouldn't it have been extinct a long time ago? Why is it still here? It's a Moonlight Ice Wolf King indeed, but not entirely either. Huh? Analyzing, level 43, level 44, Fusion Beast, this beast contains energies from both the Soul Jade and the Moonlight Ice Wolf King. Currently digesting, its strength is increasing every second. This thing is a fusion beast, with two growing strengths inside of him, he's becoming stronger at an insane speed. Chao Ji, Qian Qian, you two back off, I'll. Let me do it. I have some doubts, but I think I'll find the answers through him. Chao Ji, be careful then. Since it's a fusion beast, then this beast should originally be just an ice wolf. Sword Heart, then, the original soul of that wolf. 
As expected, it's being consumed now. Since you have yet to be consumed entirely, then this is the best time to kill you off. In this ice plains, this venerable one is about to leave his first mark. Hundred of miles away, in a random cave outside. Ugh. Thank you, Tower Head. I've never seen the Tower Head in such a state. Such panicking, nervousness, and the fear. Is it because of that cultivator? But he's such a young cultivator, why is the Tower Head so scared of him? Even just showing his face is not okay. I have been hiding my face before, and even now, I'm sure they didn't get to see my face clearly just now. But it happened a bit too suddenly earlier. I wasn't able to hide you, Rose Face. If she was seen by that Chun Chiu Mountains woman. Since it's unsure, let me prophesize it. I may not be able to prophesize Lu Chao Ge, but I can still do so for you. Just like how I managed to prophesize your death last time. Oh Lord Heavens, please give me some hints. Heavenly Secret Divination Is Tower Head doing a divination now? No matter how many times I've seen it, it's still such an amazing ability. But what's going on? What's going on? I couldn't divine it. To think I couldn't do it. To think her fate is also hidden now. This shouldn't be. A fifth or sixth rank like her couldn't possibly be able to go against the heaven's will. Is it due to him? Or another reason? What exactly happened? That cyan lotus is enough to fight against the mighty power of the heavens, perhaps. This can't go on. Or my plans in the past hundred years would all go to waste. I can't lose. This grand plan of mine, I won't lose. Tower Head looks really terrifying now. These high-level NPCs sure are great. They can directly ride on their swords, while I can't even see a single shadow of theirs. Hurry up. Run faster. Hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Start up your motor. Don't stop, darling. Don't stop. Run faster. We want to see Lu Chad GE. Although I'm not recording Lu Chao GE right now, but my viewer count is still really high. Is this how it feels to go viral? Lu Chao GE, oh, Lu Chao GE. Where are you at? Hurry up and show up. What's going on? An earthquake? What the fuck? A huge boss. It's Lu Chao GE. It's him. I can recognize him even if he turn into ashes. Chao GE. My husband. Ah. So he was killing the boss. Amazing. Legendary. Godly. Then it's all good. He's soloing such a boss too. Here it comes. My live stream is still going more viral. Tomorrow, I'm going to appear in the headlines for sure. Everyone, look. The boss unleashed its skill. Damn. Look at how sharp and rough those icicles are. Lu Chao GE might not be able to handle it. Halt. Amazing. 666. Ice control? Unfortunately, I know more about the power of heaven and earth than you do. Go. Using someone's technique against them. Using someone's technique against them. Using someone's technique against them. Lu Chao Ge is so strong, I should be fine if I get a bit closer, right? What's going on? My body, it's not listening to me anymore. Lu Chao Ge is looking at me. He's preventing me from moving forward. Just be the cameraman that you are. If you step any closer, I'll be a bit annoyed. My husband is looking at me. My husband is looking at me. My husband is looking at me. It's not that I don't want to move, it's just that I was stopped by Lo Shug. King of the Ice Wolves leveled up to level 47. Also restored all of his blood. 
He leveled up just from this simple moves. This means attacking him only makes him stronger. Roar. He controls wind and ice. Ak. I'm the king of wind and ice. This monster doesn't know when to stop. Is it still trying to overpower me in controlling elements? If that's the case, let me show you the power gap between us when it comes to controlling elements. This is the maximum power of the water element. Arg! What the fuck is going on here? This is something even the cultivators from the 8th realm in the ancient times wouldn't have been able to do. This, this is so weird. It's, it's like every single snowflake has its own will. This precise control is because Lo Shug is the first water element martial artist. And also because he got a point from the earth and heaven approach. Ak. I'll kill him. No one is allowed to control the wind and ice but me. You are good for nothing but roaring. Level 47 The King of the Ice Wolves Level 48 The King of the Ice Wolves He's still leveling up. With that spirit, he'll just keep restoring blood. There's no point in physical attacks. In this case, I'd better target the soul. Heart Sword Activate Let me see where are you hiding that soul. There isn't one? Then how? The Wild Blade Level 47 The King of the Ice Wolves Killing all those small wolves consumed a lot of mana. Uncle Lovie been fighting for so long, now he is having trouble dealing with the King of the Ice Wolves, I'm afraid he's lost his. The Fourth Realm, how on earth am I bothered with something this small? Looks like I'm overthinking, this is nothing for low. Why is it dark all of a sudden? Is it night already? Why does the moon look a bit weird? That's really weird. Looks like this is what it means to resurrect the evil spirit. Lord of the evil spirits. Evil spirit is way different than sword art. It depends mainly on the spiritual side. Uh, no matter how strong you are or the realm you reached, you won't stand my spirit affect you, brat. You can do this beside controlling wind and ice. You really are strong. But, this doesn't affect me. What's going on? Why? What is happening? This, this is. The powers of the sun and the moon in the palm of my hand. Ah, uh, my spirit is fading. Activate the heart sword. I'll cut the moon with my heart today. This is painful. Ah. Stop it. Just why? I used to play around with humans with this skill. Why won't it work on him? Who the hell is he? There. The jade spirit was hidden behind that eye. I just have to remove it and he won't be able to rise again. Level 50, the king of the ice wolves, the peak of the fourth realm, Arg, I'll kill you. You bastard. Damn it. He is just stalling. I won't be able to stop him alone once he enters the fifth realm. Above all, the jade spirit is still helping him recover his soul wounds. If I don't kill him now, I'll be the one killed. It'll be over once I remove the jade spirit. He laid down his guards. Vocal attack. The normal attack number 13, penetrating sword from the fourth realm. Shug. Arg. The Jade Spirit. The Jade Spirit. Huh, this isn't easy to acquire. Arg. Give it back. This thing is the source of your power. Now that I got the Jade Spirit, it's time to finish you for good this time. This is the end. 
Up there. Up. The hiding ability is really handy. Does this mean I can become a pro ninja? I'm well aware of this stuff. You act recklessly. Arg. The Jade Spirit, give it back. Uncle Lo's fight brought a lot of attention. We can't let them through, they'll only be in the way of Suge. I'll help too. Me and Aunt Jiang fought a lot of elder monks, this won't be a problem to us. It's Lady Jiang from Chun Shu Mountain. She reached the sixth realm. But whoever is fighting that beast is definitely a great cultivator too. Wait, don't you see me here? Oh, the saint is there as well. Over there. This sword technique is uncanny. Hey fellow Taoists, this reminds me of one person. Haha, <laughs> I think we all got the same idea. Looks like that legendary person is here in Beicho. Oh, the saint is there as well. They don't take me seriously at all. Ah, I hate this. This sword technique drained all my left mana, but that's a price I'm willing to pay to finish this wolf. Realm third stage. Penetration. The rumors are right. Seeing this is different than just hearing about it. Now I'm in level 43, but yet I feel unable to use this sword technique till 10 years. But... As a newcomer, this will be my present to Beicho. I'm getting closer and closer to that sword. What happened? I can't see him. Me too, that's a really powerful sword technique. Arg, no. It stopped snowing? Is this the power of the fourth realm? I can't do that, all I can do is attract snow to my sword. It'll snow again, in a while. Looks like he's dead. What this? You act recklessly. That. That thing again. It has disappeared. I don't know if Sinyan and the others have seen him. Well, sooner or later we'll find out. There are special items. Oh, it's a treasure. Moon Shadow, it is part of the Moon Eyed Wolf King of the Ancient Eras from the Eighth World. Moon Shadow, level 60. An item that can be used to summon Moon Shadow once. All I see is a private eyeball. But it's a good thing. The moon that bound the soul now shall be called Shadow of the Moon. So this thing can summon level 60 Moon Shadow but I'm obviously not going to use it now. At this point, I obtained a level 60 moon shadow and a jade spirit. If Hei Ting absorbed them both, how many realms would he break through? If he broke through to the fifth realm, wouldn't this be the first time in my sect that someone finally became a great sword refiner after so many years? Hei Ting, you really have a great master, which is very enviable. Shog, how are you? Did you get hurt? I have a minor injury, nothing serious. That well. Uncle Lu, you are a monster, right? You must be a powerful reincarnation from ancient eras, right? What? I'm just a part-time guy from the 22nd century, and I'm also a good driver, but what do I have to do with powerful reincarnation? Bullshit, how can there be so many reincarnations? I was just joking. I didn't expect Uncle Lou to take it so seriously, he. In addition, Uncle Lou is really famous in Baijiu now. Mr. Lou. Mr. Lou looks at me. He is really as they say he is. Bullshit, he's obviously looking at me. As soon as I saw him, I fell in love with him. Damn, he's even more handsome to look at. That's too sad. This is good. He. I just got to buy Zhou and then defeated a strange monster for fun, then I suddenly remembered my previous life. What a shame. However, why didn't Huang Quan Hui appear in such a big fanfare? When Qin Chi was killed earlier, Qi Yu Hui was in an ambush, and the demon cultivators were also nearby. 
Something is wrong. Is it possible that the person who escaped then was Quan Hui? Are they planning something? Let's go to Chuenchio Mountain. If I can't figure it out, I'd better wait for them to reveal what they're up to. I seem to have forgotten something, but I can't remember it. When will Mr. Lu come to unfreeze? You bastard, what are you going to do? Come back here. By the way, did you see anything strange when you killed the Wolf King just now? Anything strange? I don't see anything strange except you, Uncle Lu. Should what did you see? Should I tell her now? But I don't think she can handle this thing. Nothing, I'm just worried that Huang Quan is here. I won't tell her now. Let's take a look at the progress of Bai Zhou's main mission after killing the main monster. The minimum estimate is 10% in progress. After killing all those wolves and the wolf king, the amount of experience points I've gained is around 15 million. Not bad, not bad. But, Bai Zhou main mission plot, awakening of an evil soul, progress level, 5.3%, progress 5.3%. I just killed the first phase boss. Does this make sense? When I killed Chen Chi, the Sword of Hades Sword main mission progress went up to 12.9%. Could it be that Chen Chi's part is bigger than the Moonlight Ice Wolf King? Or could I have missed out something else this time? Could Bei Zhou's main plot mission be related to that? But I've seen it in Qin Zhou too. Wait, I saw it both in Qin Zhou and Bei Zhou. Could that mean? That it has been following me all this while? Seems like my identity as the Chosen One really is confirmed. Hey, once my sword heart ranks up to level 5, I can cleanly kill that eyeball and take its experience points. Chao Ji. I remembered the lady who ran away earlier at the Ice Plains and where she's from. She's called Yuro, one of the Twelve Tower Lords at the Heavenly Secret Tower. Are you sure? Heavenly Secret Tower. Could they also be one of the strong forces to be reckoned with? Yes. I went to the Heavenly Secret Tower once along with my senior sister, He. The one who welcomed us was Tower Lord Yuro. Marshal Aunt Zhang's senior sister, He, is Chun Chiu Mountain's elder, He Lian. Elder He Lian, I've ran into her a few times when I entered Chun Chiu Mountain in my past life. After cultivating Chen Chiu Mountain's cultivation ways, what she emphasized on was her desire to control. They always say, flat-chested people are evil, but this elder is the opposite. She's fulfilled there, but quite vicious. Heavenly Secret Tower's Tower Lord, Yu Ro, if it really was her, then who is the other person? Things seem to have gotten quite complicated. Huh, I've heard that above the Twelve Tower Lords, there's still another mysterious tower head? Yes. The Heavenly Secret Tower was established thousands of years ago, but every generation's tower head has been mysterious. No one has really seen this mysterious and well-hidden figure. But they have all been called with the same title. The Heavenly Secret Messenger. Then could the second person we saw then the Heavenly Secret Messenger? What a waste. We almost saw the face of that mysterious person. The rumors have it that all twelve tower lords are great beauties too. Then the person who unites all of them, wouldn't she be a pretty lady too? The kind that exudes elegance and grace. Nonsense. No matter who the second person is, the heavenly secret tower has always been a force to be wary of. We'll eventually cross paths with them again. Heavenly secret, I wonder who is scarier, the heavenly secret messenger, or me, who is the chosen one. Hey, what am I even worrying about? Why does that even need to be said? Beijo Heavenly Secret Tower. My poor white long legs. I wonder when things can take a better turn. That Ice Wolf King was too strong. Even after taking the Tower Head's pill, it still didn't fully recover. Sigh, the me right now really is too weak. I can't even do anything. You row. I'm here. Give me a drop of your blood essence. T to give him a drop of my blood essence when I'm in this weak state? Even for someone as strong as Chao Ge, to give away a drop of blood essence is similar to draining your body dry. Hurry. Yes.
It's still not possible. I still can't do it. I can't see through it. Not even Jiang Xian Yan's fate, I can no longer predict it. It seems like, Yu Ro, definitely been exposed. When a chess piece loses its camouflage, then it's time to discard it. Thanks to her beauty, I can use her in many other ways. There may be a large number of people who are fascinated by her. But, follow me. Yes, master. We arrived. Huh? Arg. Ma. Moss. Master? Your identity has been exposed. You are useless now. An alien energy absorbing insect. You row, it was easy to exploit her as I wanted. It was good to train her myself. Ha, time passed quickly. A thousand years have passed in the blink of an eye. I've trained a lot over these years, but she was in the top five of my heart. I pity her. It's time to go back. Lu Chauga, I haven't felt this negative inside me for hundreds of years. I hate this feeling. I still have the talent. Even a lousy fish like this has another taste. However, hunting experience also plays a role. Wind, wow, did you hear the news? The Moon-Eyed Ice Wolf King was killed by Lu Chauga alone. Amazing. Has the news started to spread? Sky, what? I don't think he did it alone. Earth, this is suspicious. Gold, this is suspicious. Well, you suspect me, right? Wind, not only did he kill him, but he also made a breakthrough, unleashed an enormous force on that monster. Good, good, that's how a true fan is. Sky, what? But wasn't it breakthrough just a short time ago? Earth, a breakthrough so quickly? Gold, so the rumor that he killed Ching Chi from the Jinjong sect was true. Wind, we should be proud of Uncle Lu. Pretend you didn't see anything. Sky, I didn't see anything. Earth won, Gold won. It is too late to hide your identity now. Three people from this group had recognized your identity by seeing your real body, Chan Chan. But even so, what you're doing has made me satisfied with you. However, I don't know her purpose for doing this. Brother Chauga had reached the fourth realm so quickly, with this breakthrough speed, he would pass me by without even noticing. No, no there is no time for an action anymore. He's really lazy as he only trains 16 hours a day, so if he doesn't train 24 hours a day he will disappear from the competitor's list. It's time to take a solitude trip. Smells amazing. You are lucky, Aunt Jiang. For a man like Uncle Lu, if he were a woman, he would be attractive to men. You did well. In the group chat, you contributed greatly to my promotion. What? Why did Uncle Lu suddenly praise me? This is really strange. Oh, is it possible that Uncle Chauga is praising me for raising the issue of Tianji Mountain? Her thoughts have gone too far, Uncle Lu, Aunt Jiang. We should go together to Tianji Mountain and kill the master along with you Ro by surprise. Wait a minute, I'm going to have this soup first, it's very tasty. Now that we've discovered her identity, let's set out to find out what they're up to and who's behind it all. This will not be impossible anymore. What I said definitely impressed Uncle Lo. Uncle Lu, praise me. Praise me more. I will do whatever he wants, and I will always listen to him. Not now. What's wrong with what I said? I thought I was right. But all I got was a cold response from him. The biggest problem is that I didn't understand what he meant at all, but if I asked him about it now, how would I save my face? Uncle Lo will think I'm stupid, and that's not good. Fine, as you want. Calm down, calm down, whether I understand or not, I have to keep calm. And I'll leave it to someone else. Chan Chien may act recklessly in this matter, which may cause negative effects. And Yu Ro and Tianji Mountain case has no place for recklessness in it. After all, Yu Ro is only a bait to lure prey. So, any mistake could end everything. 
The spices are about to run out, so let's look for a small town to buy some spices from. There is a small town nearby. Wait, this is a small town in Northern State. As long as there are people, there will be goods. It is a very lively town. What is the difference between these two bottles? And why does one cost two cents more? They look exactly alike. And I don't know which one Uncle Lou would choose. I heard that demon cultivators have appeared again recently. Is this correct? Has anyone been killed? I heard that they found Master Euro's body from Tianji Mountain. She was the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. It's a loss that she died. Tianji Mountain had also offered a huge reward. What is your opinion? On that day, Euro was seriously injured, so it seemed that she had lost a lot of blood. I wonder if she was also kidnapped by a demonic cultivator where she was sacrificed. Do you think she was sacrificed? Was she really sacrificed? In my previous life, there were spirits in many holy places in the four regions, so what role did Tianji Mountain play? Who would have believed that Tianji Mountain had a connection with those spirits? But that didn't matter now. I had to focus my attention on Tianji San Ren's identity. Although I travel a lot, I have never seen anything like him. I also don't have any evidence about him. He's really mysterious and terrifying. After I return to Chuenchio Mountain, why don't I inform the sect about this matter? We will tell the master first and then we will follow his decision. Chuenchio Mountain will not help with this as they do not know the situation we are in. Hmm. You are right. Master can certainly be trusted, but others cannot be trusted. In addition, Uncle Lu, you will definitely like the master very much. What? What is this rush to anticipate events? Why does he have this expression? Wait, I remembered. I read on the forum in my previous life that there was a tyrannical desire of Chuenchio Mountain Master, and it was. Master really likes good-looking people. Uncle Lu is such a good-looking person. That's right. The Sacred Master's greatest desire is lust. He possesses one of the most powerful combat weapons, with his position in the first rank in terms of strength, and he is considered one of the four most powerful people in the world. He not only has experience, but also tremendous knowledge. Do not worry, Master's lust is the love of beautiful things only because he is addicted to them to the extreme. He won't do anything strange to you. Yes, yes, but the problem is that when he sees beautiful things, he cannot control himself. So what might he do? He makes beautiful things to the extreme that fit what he sees. For example, he might make Aunt Jen sexy skirts. Hey! All kinds of sexy skirts. Who would miss out on a deal like this? Shut up! What is there to be surprised about? I'm used to it. Master lets me try on a bunch of different skirts too anyways. Peking Chien does that too? How many fans would she gain from that? W wouldn't that charm a bunch of nightclub princes to death? Just amazing. Ahem, ahem. How can a man's mind be filled with these kinds of things all the time? I must think of greater things, such as... Oh no, my mind has its own way of thinking now. Chow Ji? Ahem, I understand now. The saint only likes things that appear beautiful. Everyone has a tendency to lean towards pretty things. There's nothing to worry about. Glad you understand. Of course I understand. The saint equals a beauty blogger plus fashion blogger. I suddenly remembered that Xian Yin doesn't like wearing dresses, but that time, she did. Xian Yin, you actually look beautiful in dresses. After a few complicated thoughts, Chao Ji Yi and the others decided to not rush towards their destination anymore and chose to rest in an inn for the night. There are indeed many people who leaked the news of Euro's death on the forum. From her looks, she really did die from being drained dry. It can only be the work of a demonic cultivator. After all, only demonic cultivators can suck someone dry to that point. 
The Heavenly Secret Tower is playing the victim now. But, what exactly is the truth? Come in. Why aren't you coming in? Chao Ji. She really took my words to heart. A dress like this, I've never seen her wear it even in my past life. Is, is it a little weird? Come, sit here. Okay. It looks really good. Exceptionally beautiful. A dress is still inconvenient at the end. Just be yourself. Wear what you like. But today, it's definitely a feast for the eyes. Chow G.E., are there many things in your heart that you want to do? He has too many fateful encounters with demonic cultivators, soul jades and all, and sometimes he'd zone out too. At that time, I always felt like he didn't fit into this world. I'm afraid, afraid that he'll one day disappear from this world. I do indeed have many things I want and need to do, however. Chow G.E., you don't need to tell me anything. You don't need to tell me. Just go and do what you need to. I'll forever stand by your side. Chin Zhou. For the first and second best swordsman from the legendary four swordsmen in Qing Zhou to be walking together, the sight of this would make anyone who sees it fall from utter shock. After all, them being together means they're unbeatable. Will I meet Lu Chao Ge on our trip to Mo Sec this time? I can't promise you that. Even I don't know his whereabouts all the time. However, senior brother, our sect leader sure is generous this time. I didn't expect him to reward Chao Ge with a sword testing stone. A sword testing stone can allow any disciple to sharpen their sword technique and sword aura. It's a really useful tool for a sect. The sect leader is indeed very generous this time round. After all, a sword testing stone can be used up to 100 years. It must have troubled him. Chin Chi revived from death, and they were as close as parent and child. Yet, he died once again. I'm afraid the wound in his heart has reopened. But despite that, he still showed such generosity towards the M.O. sect and even gifted them a sword testing stone that only the top 50 sects in the upper 100 sects can own. The burden he shoulders is truly not any lesser than mine. If we don't get to meet Chao G.E. again this time, would you be disappointed, senior brother? Don't get to meet him? My direct disciple is a close friend to him. My daughter has stayed at his place for some time too. I've even met a M.O. sex disciple at Senior Luo's place. Fate truly is something hard to grasp. I won't. Because one day we'll meet for sure. What senior brother means is that he looks forward to meeting Chao G.E. at the peak of swordsmanship. How annoying. Why am I always one step away from him? Humph, always just one step away. So aggravating. Humph. When we reach M.O. Sect, remember to guide little Lizzy well. You can't act partial towards her. You have to treat her like you treat you you and Nan Wei. I'm also very curious about Xiao Lizzy. After all, she's your disciple. Which means she's like a disciple to me too. Did I say something wrong again? Junior brother doesn't look too happy. Fly faster then. Why are you always so slow? Sai, I'm coming, I'm coming. M.O. Sect Pan Ching Mountain. The protection array is quite interesting. This protection array was a joint effort by my two disciples. Xiao Li Zi was the main constructor, making sure no one could invade. As for the weird misty surroundings, it was set up by Chao Ge. I see. It seems like Junior Brother's disciples are prominent talents. You you that Brad doesn't know the way of protection arrays, right? Yes, yes. You you naturally doesn't know. He's not as talented in this aspect compared to little Lee Z. I found it. Let's go in then. Junior Brother, you can easily get in without being discovered with your skills. Why do you steal? Little Lizzie is super cautious. She hates being surprised. 
Follow closely, but let out a bit of your presence. Don't make it so that she can't sense you at all. Junior brother sure thinks about his disciple well. Ha! Hey! Huh! Master, how is my swordsmanship training today? This is bad. Xiao Qiu is truly doomed. How is she exactly the same? Brother's weird traits are really spreading. Someone came in using the access plate. It's brother. Brother is back. I haven't finished speaking. Huh? Little Li Zi. I'm here to see you. I greet master and senior. Master brought a senior here this time too. I wonder if this is the senior brother he often mentioned. Ah. It's the grandpa who causes problem. Grandpa is fun, but if you play around for too long, Xiao Qiu will be mad. Short arms, short legs, I, I am going back. Where are you going? Play with this grandpa today too. How is it? My disciple isn't too shabby, right? Huh? This lady. Junior brother's disciple really is great. A small MO sect, yet they have a pair of talents, truly impressive. He's someone who calls master as a junior brother, D doesn't that mean. This is the one that I rarely mention to you, your martial uncle. You clearly always mentioned him. Don Lee greets martial uncle sword sovereign. The sword sovereign who stands at the top of swordsmanship to think he came to our little MO sect. Isn't this too obvious? Master, you're really tactless. Did I offend my disciple somewhere again? He's the sword sovereign? Are you really the sword sovereign? This frail man looks like he can't even take one punch from me. Yup. This child's talent, if she's in the sword sect, she'd grow to stand out well. He, he I'm called Xiao Qiu. Xiao Qiu. You can't be so impolite. Come here. It's all right. This child seems energetic. I'm sure her future will be bright. Then, will I become even stronger than you? Why do you want to be stronger than me? Because our sect leader said from the day he held a sword, he understood how in terms of swordsmanship, he's unparalleled, number one in the world. And I, Xiao Qiu, want to be as strong and great of a person as him. Where can I find a hole in the ground and bury myself in it forever? Brother, really? Why do you always spout nonsense in front of a child? Is it similar? Yes. From the day I held a sword, I knew I'll become unparalleled, number one in the world. Truly, too similar. I was born to hold a sword. That's right, it's exactly the same as us when we were young. Ahem. My disciple was mad at me earlier. I think it must be about that matter. Why aren't you taking it out yet? Our gift. Oh, L, let me find it. Junior brother didn't tell me in advance about this, though. Master always said the sword sovereign isn't anything special in front of him, but who knew that would be true? What should I take out so junior brother won't be angry at me again? If I gave too much, far more than what he wanted to, he'll scold me. But if I gave anything lesser, he would be unhappy and scold me too. Didn't you have an undying doll? Take it out. All right, all right. Marshal Mies Dong Lee, take it. I'm glad Junior Brother just mentioned what he wants me to give her. I won't be scolded now. Dong Lee thanks Marshal Uncle. Another undying doll. Now I have two. Brother won't reject it this time if I try giving it to him, right? If he rejects it again, I'll get mad. A healthy young girl who's obviously afraid of death, but still worries for her brother. Little Li Zi, are you not inviting us in for some tea? Ah, my apologies. Master, Marshal Uncle, this way please. M.O. Sex Main Hall looks grand, and their ancestors are all impressive people. No wonder they have such a pair of siblings now. Really? Too simple. M.O. Sect had long since fallen. It's only surviving because of my disciple and Chao Ge supporting it. Being a sect elder who isn't even 20 years old yet, and being a sect leader who is only 20 years old. Have you seen it anywhere else? 
These two children's paths in life are much more arduous than both of us can imagine. Sword's Edge has sharpened them well. This pair of siblings, junior brother, you have people to inherit your legacy now. Of course. Master, Marshal Uncle, let me go prepare some tea for you. Sit, sit. No need for you to do it. Don't you love making tea? You can drink tea by yourself for a few hours sometimes. Go and make it yourself. Master, are you really hearing yourself? This is the Sword Sovereign we're talking about. Is Sword Sovereign Grandpa really going to listen to this annoying grandpa? Little Lee Z, no need to be so polite. I can do it myself. Lord Sword Sovereign is really going to make his own tea. Sword Sovereign Grandpa is listening to annoying grandpa. Marshal Uncle, please sit down and let me. Junior Brother, please drink. Didn't they say that Sword Sovereign Grandpa is the strongest in the world? Why does it look like the annoying grandpa has more authority? There's no need for reservation today. Let the other disciples outside enter as well. Everyone, come in. Huh. MO6 disciples, each one is weirder than the other one. We greet Lord Sword Sovereign. Marshal Uncle, that is Hei Ting, my brother's only disciple. This is Luo Bing, my first disciple. And this is MO Dong Fong, also my disciple. Your luck is a little weird. As expected of Lord Sword Sovereign. He was able to see through it in one glance. Your luck is a little weird. M.O. Dong Fong, sect leader has said it before too. And my luck is indeed sometimes good and sometimes bad. When it was bad, it was even life endangering. But when it's good, it's like I'm the one chosen by the heavens. You have good luck, but you're unable to absorb it all yet. Which is why there are backlashes and sometimes it has the opposite effect. Since decades ago, people with such great luck have been rarer than rare. To think I'd run into one in the M.O. sect. Luck? How come I can't see it? If your cultivation was just a bit higher, you could see it too, junior brother. So you're laughing at my cultivation being low now? No, I wouldn't dare. Come, come. Junior brother, have some tea. Since you're able to see through his luck, do you have any methods to solve the backlashes? If there really is such a thing, then I won't have to be unlucky anymore. There is indeed a solution to this, but it's not necessary. A. Eh? Answer properly. The solution is to remove a part of his luck and disperse it to the world. Then, his luck will not be that heavy, and so, it won't cause any backlashes. So it's not necessary. It won't be long until you are able to take on all of this luck in your body. To think my luck is fluctuating due to the fact that I have too much luck. Thankfully, brother isn't here, or else he would surely. Of course you are lucky. How else would you have run into a chosen one like me? Ha ha ha. Hey. When you say it won't be long, how exactly longer will it be? Can you give an accurate estimate? This, there's no exact time. It could be tomorrow, or next year, or even, much longer. Seems like for me to withstand all my luck, I will have to depend on myself. It seems like there are things that you don't know about either. That is natural. Who would know about everything in this world? Then, look at that young girl over that. What is abnormal about her? Hmm? My talent is lower than Xiao Qiu, but higher than junior brother M.O., yet... Now he has such great luck too. In M.O. sect, I'm considered the most average one then. I came from a lowly background. My talent is also low. Aside from my looks, I really have nothing special. No need to be nervous. Let me ask you, do you remember where you were born? When brother and I bought Luo Bing's freedom from the brothel, we were worried she would be hurt if we asked her about her past, so we didn't. Even the two of us don't know where she's from either. I don't remember. From the earliest day I can remember, I was already at that brothel, the aunt there raised and taught me personally, until I turned 13 and met young lord who spent so much money to buy my freedom. 
since my parents sold me to the brothel, why should I go and think about them? Anyway, I now have a place I can call home and people who think of me kindly. Is that so? If you have the opportunity, perhaps you can find a time to go to Lujo's White Deer Forest. Perhaps, there might be something there waiting for you. Giving it another vague hint? Junior brother, please don't scold me. This matter is closely related to my close friend's secret. And since I'm guessing, I can't say for sure. Close friend, White Deer Forest, is there such a thing? Lujo's White Deer Forest. One of the four biggest lands in the world, I've never been there before. You are? Huh? He's Lu Chao Ge's only direct disciple, Hey Ting. Hey. Ting. Why are you? This kid, the evil aura in him is insane. And this child has such a high cultivation which is at fourth rank. But aside from his rank, none of his other strengths or traits match a fourth rank. Furthermore, I remember when little Lee Z introduced him, yet I didn't notice until junior brother reminded me about him. Such a weak presence, it's abnormal and rare as well. It really is quite strange. Can you come closer? Close your eyes, meditate. The strongest person in Ching Zhou, will he be able to see through my secret? Will he find out the truth of me absorbing soul jades? Will this affect master? All right. It's done? It looks like he did not find out my secret about the soul jades. Your body nature is really weird. And earlier, I could detect that the dark aura inside you is very high. Dark aura? Does that dark aura bring bad luck? Evil aura? What's dark aura? Can it be eaten? Brother once said that someone has labeled Hei Ting as one that carries the demon seed. Could that be seen through by a martial uncle? Senior brother Hei Ting is a good guy. Definitely not a bad guy with dark aura. Sword Sovereign Martial Uncle, what will he say about Hei Ting next? The tea is finished. All right, all right. Let me refill it. I've told you ages ago to not dive so deeply into the art of seeing through auras. At first glance, everyone's auras is colorful. Even if I ask you, what does the color purple, red, or black mean, you yourself don't know and can't answer. So just don't overthink it. It's nothing, it's nothing. I was just pointing out it was black in color. It's only one of the many color, maybe that's just all it is. Phew, thankfully he didn't try to do anything. Drink your tea, stop nagging. Go on with what you were doing. No need to accompany us two geezers. Little Lee Z, you can stay. I'll get him to teach you some things later. He might not be as great at teaching as me, but he's still the sword sovereign, so you won't lose anything from listening a bit. Master's bragging like crazy again. At this time, Lu Chao Ge still didn't know that one of the four strongest men, the sword sovereign himself, had dropped by the M.O. sect, or else, he would be very worried that the little ancestor would be discovered. Chun Chiu Mountain, we'll get there tomorrow. When I think about Chun Chiu Mountain, there are so many things about it from my past life that come to mind. For example, Chun Chiu Mountain actually is a sect with mainly women. All my senior sisters were great beauties who were also strong. Truly, a paradise. After all, Chun Chiu Mountain's founder was also a woman and for every generation after that, it was also a female. However, all the females here have developed weird kinks and interests due to the nature of their cultivation. Although I can't really share the details, there are a lot of crazy people in Chun Chiu Mountain. However, Chun Chiu Mountain's cultivation style somehow suited women more. And it is also in the north, which is why they don't have that many disciples. If it expanded as much as the sword sect, then Beijo would be filled with crazy perverts everywhere. Marshal Uncle Lu, we're almost there. We're about to meet Marshal Aunt Zhang's close friends now. I wonder if Marshal Uncle Lu is nervous. Marshal Aunt Jiang is one of the most famous beauties in our sect. And the one to make her fall is a young sword cultivator from Qing Zhou. Everyone must be looking forward to how he looks. Yeah, I know. Why is he so calm? Huh? 
That's weird. Why is Marshal Aunt Jiang so nervous instead? It'll be all right. Okay. Marshal Aunt Jiang is truly head over heels. Is this Chun Chiu Mountain? Huh? Beijo's rank one great sect, Chun Chiu Mountain Ah. We're already here. Marshal Uncle Lu, please wait a little. I'll go open up the protection array first then bring you in. No need. I'm a guest. And as a guest, I have to act with manners. Mo6 Lu Chao G E is here to visit. Mo6 Lu Chao G E is here to visit. Mo6 Lu Chao G E is here to visit. Lu Chao G E is here. Lu Chao G E, the one from Qing Zhou's Mo sect, is he here with Marshal Ant Jiang? Will the sect leader who once pursued Marshal Ant Jiang clash with him? Don't speak nonsense. If the sect leader hears it, you won't be eating for days. Mo6 Lu Chao G E is here to visit. Mo6 Lu Chao G E is here to visit. Finally, he's here. Don Lee thanks Marshal Uncle Sword Sovereign for your guidance. As Junior Brother has said, Little Lee Z learns really quickly. Show her once, and she gets it. Humph. Look at whose disciple she is. I have to admit that when Marshal Uncle Sword Sovereign teaches, he's definitely better than Master. It's direct, simple, and easy to understand. Yet, it's also so enlightening. I've gained so much today. Is this the Sword Sovereign who stands at the peak of swordsmanship? If Master finds out what I'm currently thinking, I'm sure he'll get super mad, and he might even fight 300 matches with Marshal Uncle Sword Sovereign. Little Easy. I actually came bringing a reward for your brother on behalf of the Sword Sect this time. Huh? Lu Chao Ge slayed the evil and killed the disciple who betrayed us, Chen Chi. Our sect leader has specially rewarded M.O. Sect with a sword testing stone. Sword Sect sect leader is rewarding us M.O. Sect? Brother killed Chen Chi, who is the direct disciple who is as close as a son to the sect leader. Usually, it wouldn't be a reward, but a terrifying punishment as revenge. This sword testing stone, I'm afraid it was thanks to Master, Marshal Uncle, and Aunt Ning's help. Don Lee thanks Master and Marshal Uncle. I know nothing about this matter at all. It's your master that did it. Finally, there's a chance to let junior brother shine. Hey, senior brother, you occasionally know how to act too, huh? Little Lee Z, your master didn't act entirely out of bias either. It was your brother, Chao Ji Yi, who did things the right way and in a very firm way too. He hasn't returned to the sect after leaving the mountain, right? Yeah, he doesn't think about his home at all. Then I'm sure there are some things you aren't aware of. Do you know what he said after killing Chen Chi? Huh? What was it? I think I know, but I still want to hear it. He said his conscience is clear, and so he killed him. Ha ha ha. It was great, truly great. As expected of brother. I could feel how righteous and firm Lu Chao Ji Yi was, but the one he killed was still the direct disciple of our sword sect after all. We should be the ones to be ashamed for having such a disciple. Oh, right. Little Li Zi. Has Yang Shu sent any letters? Ah. Did Marshal Uncle meet Yang Shu before? We haven't heard anything from him since he left the mountain. I get worried from time to time. I went to visit Senior Luo at Luo He Mountain some days ago and saw him there. Senior Luo views him as the one to inherit his legacy, so I'm sure he'll teach and guide him meticulously. Senior Luo? One of the strongest four swordsmen and the most senior one of all four? Yang Shu became the one to inherit his legacy? What? Senior Luo took in Yang Shu as his disciple? Yes. That Yang Shu is Little Li Zi's disciple. Little Li Zi is my disciple. And Senior Luo is Yang Shu's master, so doesn't that mean? Junior brother, Senior Luo did not actually take him in as a disciple. He only sees him like a grandson and treats him like one. Yang Shu calls Senior Luo as grandpa too, not master. 
Humph, boring. Mo sect, a sect that is in the lower hundred sects under sword sect. Yang Shu got such a golden opportunity, this, boring, truly boring. Perhaps in just a few more years, Mo sect would stand out in the whole of Qing Zhou. Great. Outstanding talents in this era is more than welcome, it shows the strength of this generation. Furthermore, the wind that once destroyed the whole of the ancient world seemed to be blowing it again. I have a premonition. M.O. sect might be one of the lower hundred sects, but their tea is not bad. Both her master and martial uncle are here. Little Lee Z wouldn't just take out cheap stuffs for us. But I'm quite curious, with your carefree nature, why would you think of staying here for a few days? Of course it's because of you, and how you've been looking quite down these days. Senior brother seems to be clouded with a lot of thoughts lately. As your junior brother for so many years, I can tell right away. There's no one who knows you better than I do. Speak up. Few days ago, I had a hunch on something so I left the mountain for a bit. And then? Nothing. Then stop thinking so much on your own. Every single day, hour, moment of your life, you are worried about the people and the world. Overthinking about everything. As if you're the only one with brains in this world. We are the sword cultivators. If there's a problem, then draw your sword. If one slash can't solve it, then two slashes. Humph. Thank you, junior brother. Humph, I've drank the tea and said what I wanted to. I'm going to go cultivate now. I'll surpass you one of these days. At that time, I'll use my sword to settle every injustice in this world. Then I shall wait for that day to arrive. The moonlight is so pretty today. Not taking a walk would be such a waste. T this aura, could the one in this coffin be that person? If it really is that person, then I can't use my spiritual consciousness, it's too disrespectful. Senior, may I request your presence here to meet you? Could it be my imagination earlier? Is it not that person in the grave? That can't be. I wouldn't be able to pinpoint that senior so accurately if it was just my imagination. Furthermore, if it really is that senior within that grave, then one of the people in M.O. sick would be. Today, I must meet that senior within this grave. Senior, may I request your presence here to meet you? It's not that they're unwilling to show up, but it's because she has selective hearing issue. If I've asked three times and she's unwilling to see me, then it shall be fate. Senior. This junior comes from the sword sex Nameless Mountain, under the Heizhou Forest lineage. May I request to see you once? I didn't guess wrongly. To think the senior really is in the M.O. sect. But why is it M.O. sect? Chun Chiu Mountain. Lu Chao Ji. The rumors are true. To think there's someone who looks this handsome in real life, they were all correct. We can really die in peace after seeing Lu Chao Ji e in person. Not only does he look good, he carries himself well too. Look, how dignified. What the fuck? I've seen Lu Chao Ji e. Damn, he's even more handsome than in the videos. Whoa, bro, can you also please play with me now? So this is the guy who made junior sister Jiang fall head over heels. That looks of his, there really isn't a single flaw to pick out. Chun Chiu Mountain Elder Xie Chun Chiu Mountain Elder Chang. Senior Brother Chang, what do you think the sect leader is thinking about right now? How would I know? Sect leader is well known to favor women over men. She treats her junior sisters like goddesses, but treats her junior brothers like sandbags. If you speak lightly, at most you'll get a forehead flick, but if I were to speak my mind, I'll get thrown away. Junior sisters, yeah, how about you go and welcome sect leader Lu then? Huh? Yes, sect leader. 
Aaron's fell on you instead. He he he. What are you laughing at? How about you come with me? Junior sister, can I reject? Let's see you try. Marshal Uncle Lu, that's our elders from Chuenchio Mountains, Marshal Uncle Ching and Marshal Aunt Xie. Chuenchio Mountain is giving me quite a lot of face. I'm just a mere sect leader of a lower hundred sect. To think they sent two elders to welcome me. Sect leader Lu, it's great to finally see you in person. This man truly isn't ordinary at all. Seeing him from afar or up close, he looks good regardless. Truly feels like I'm looking at a painting of a saint. However, why is this outsider who came to visit appear so confident while junior sister Jiang, who's coming back to the sect, appears so nervous? Elder Xie, Elder Chang. Looks like this man's looks, aura, and character are all pretty good. It's hard not to be jealous for a man like this. Let's not talk here. Sect leader Lu, please follow me. This is Chun Chiu Mountain. The view is one of the best in the world. That's the place where our new disciples reside in. And over there, it's Chun Chiu Mountain's top, it's called. Elders, why aren't we heading to the main hall yet? How much longer do we have to go around the sect in circles? Do you think I don't want to bring him straight to the main hall? But the problem is, the sect leader has yet to tell us to do so. The sect leader of Chun Chiu Mountain, what were they doing at this moment? This venerable one, just why can't I find a set of clothes that look better than that Lu Chao GE? This venerable one likes wearing black clothes, yet that Lu Chao GE likes wearing black. They're both black robes, but why is it that I just don't look as good as him? Humph. It's just a set of clothes. What is there to it? Chun Chiu Mountain Sect leader who had emptied his whole storage ring's clothes and changed into each of them is now going against himself. L look over there. That's Chun Chiu Mountains. That is. That is the bathroom that Chun Chiu Mountain's female disciples use. How dare you introduce this? I don't have a choice. We've already talked about every single thing in the sect. If we drag this out any longer, even I'd be sick of listening. What exactly is the sect leader thinking? He has no regard for us who have to welcome them and bring them around. It's really awkward. Bring him to the main hall. It's a message from the sect leader. Sect leader Lu. We've finished touring everything there is that is worth looking at. How about following us to the main hall and have a sit for a while? Sure. Let's go, let's go. To the main hall. Coming back to the same place is actually quite interesting. It's just that my relationship with my master wasn't like this at that time. The Chun Chiu Mountain's peak is way too high, isn't it? If I can fly, I won't ever take a step and climb this mountain ever again. Continue walking. If you want to be taken in by Chun Chiu Mountain, your determination now is not enough. Who said I can't move anymore? Not only can I move, I'll make sure to walk faster than anyone else. Silly boy. I used to look so miserable. Those days are still fresh in my mind. Fortunately, Xian Yin doesn't have those memories. Or else it would be very awkward between us. Chao Ji Yi is looking at me. Is he hinting not to worry? But I am still very nervous. Sure enough, humans simply cannot read each other's minds. Sect Leader Lu, we are here at the main hall. Chun Chiu Mountain's main hall. As a small player in my past life, I've never stepped into a place like this where only the higher up could. As expected of the biggest sect in Beijo. Even their main hall is on a completely different level compared to the MO sect. However, although I never stepped inside this place in my past life, I've come here before. Lu Chaoga I've seen the main entrance before, cause I was a guard. Everyone here is a great cultivator. Every single one of them could shock the world around them wherever they go. This is what Chun Chiu Mountain really is. Xian Yin got embarrassed. She's shy. 
It's my first time seeing Xian Yin like this. How interesting. Is this how she is after meeting her fated beloved soulmate? How fun. Qing Zhou's strongest in the new era. Truly impressive. Such good looks, and so young too. No wonder junior sister Xian Yin fell for him. Not cowering even in such a situation. He's not an ordinary man. It seems like the sect leader has yet to arrive. Does he like that the boss always arrives late plot? Sect leader Lu, please take a seat. Marshal Uncle Lu is sitting at the guest seat. Then where will Marshal Aunt Jiang choose to sit then? Will she sit on her deacon seat or will she sit on the guest seat with him? If she chooses to sit with him at the guest seat, then I'm super looking forward to the expression of the sect leader who is his love rival. However, with so many of us here, and Marshal Aunt Jiang being so shy, I don't think she'll sit with Marshal Uncle Lu at the guest seats. Where will Junior Sister Jiang choose to sit? If she were to sit at the guest seat being the Chunchio Mountains Deacon, that pretty much conveys that she's going to follow him wherever he goes and chooses after they get married. There are so many people here. If you feel embarrassed, go back to your own seat. I'll be fine. I'll sit wherever you sit. Ah, they truly are the perfect couple. How envious. They really make me feel envious. I'm one of the most emotional people here at Chanchio Mountain, but seeing the two of them today, I pale in comparison. Right in front of the crowd. Aren't they aware of manners? Who knows what tricks that brat used to seduce Chun Chio Mountain's Ice Queen's heart. Aside from looking a little handsome, having quite good cultivation, who has high comprehension skills, what else does he have? Chun Chio Mountain's sect lender Hang In. We greet the sect leader. Sect leader is a really good looking person as well. Unfortunately, he still pales a little in comparison to Marshal Uncle Lu, and being just half a head shorter too, in Chao Ji's words instead, that would be his level 9 charm lost to his level 10 charm. Chun Chiu Mountain Sect Leader, Hang Ying. He's the most unreasonable tyrant among the four sect leaders of the four great sects. Sect Leader Lu. Is this the first time you came to my Beijo? Sect leader's voice is still so low and magnetic. Sounds so good. Just from voice alone, he can definitely go up against sect leader Lu. It's a true indulgence listening to the sect leader's voice. It's indeed my first time here. My past life doesn't count, so this is indeed my first time in this life. Your first time here, and you've already helped us eliminate a Moonlight Snow Werewolf King. Seems like it made total sense that Qian Qian lost to you. Sect leader, really. Make all the small talks you want, but don't use my loss as a topic. Qian Qian was suppressing her cultivation then. Or with my rank 3 cultivation, I wouldn't have been her match. Marshal Uncle Lu is the best. You were rank 3 then. But you leveled up 10 times in a day and now you're rank 4, level 3, right? Yes. There's such a thing too? This is even more of a genius than the sect leader and the saint when they were young. I thought it was just a lie when I heard the rumors back then. But since the sect leader asked about it today, it has to be true. With sect leader Lu's talent, Qian Qian would have never been able to match up to you. Sect leader, you're so annoying. However, that's not important. What's important is, it's here, it's here. Matters related to junior sister Jiang. Sect leader couldn't hold himself back, huh? Love rivals have met. It's hard to contain himself. He, he finally onto the main topic. I've waited so long. Is he going to ask about Xian Yin? Go ahead. I'll handle whatever it is. This venerable one. This venerable one has set up a simple dinner tonight. Does sect leader Lu have anything you can't eat? What kind of important matter is this? I waited for nothing. 
What happened to the meeting of love rivals and their intense clashing? None. What kind of plan is he scheming right now? That's good. Then I'll let you guys continue talking. This venerable one has something else to tend to. He's leaving? I built the suspense for ten chapters, though. And this is it? We send the sect leader off. Sect leader's looking at me. Did you notice? I saw. It seems like the dinner banquet tonight is the true welcoming gift from Chanchio Mountain. Congrats to the couple. Can we ask how you two met? Junior sister Jiang is well known to be the coldest here. You sure are amazing, sect leader Lu. Furthermore, aside from the sect leader, there's a lot of people here who seem displeased that I managed to pluck the flower, which is Sinyan. Senior, I really didn't expect it to you. Huh, what? What did you say? Senior, I said, I really didn't expect it to you. Oh, you recognize me. Did we meet anywhere? I've naturally never seen you before, Senior. I don't know your exact identity either, but I just can tell your aura. You don't know me. How can you tell my aura? I was about to get to that. I'm a descendant of the Black Bamboo Forest lineage. We had made a promise with Senior. It was a promise from the day our sect was founded. Oh, what is it? Does your founder know me? I do not know, but according to his will, if we have any chance of meeting you in the future, I must return something you left in our protection back to you. Promise? Thing? Will? Founder? My head spinning, or was little head can't process this much information. It's going to lag and shut down. Spiritual barriers limitation deactivated, senior, perhaps you have seen this before. It might bring back memories. Do you recognize it? No, do you know what's in it? I, this was passed down by my ancestors. And there will is that, whichever descendant can open this box, then whatever is inside will belong to them. From our founder till now, it's been tens of thousands of years. Yet, in our entire lineage, no one has been able to open it. You kept it for that many years, but you're going to give it to me now? If we can't open it, we have to keep passing it down and help you keep it. And the aura on this thing and your grave is exactly the same. It does feel familiar, especially. This messy writing reminds me of someone, but I can't recall the specifics. But since you're giving it to me, I'll accept it then. Thanks. Sometimes, it's hard to tell if she's really smart or stupid. Senior, before I give it to you, can I just try one last time if I can tear open the seal? H.M., sure. Thank you, Senior. Tens of thousands of years. So many ancestors couldn't open this. This item has ceased to feel like a treasure to our lineage anymore. Instead, it feels like a kind of stubbornness we have towards it. This unbearable seal has troubled our entire lineage for so long. This will be my last try today. After this, I'll let go of my stubbornness. Our entire lineage will stop being bound by this. Today, our black bamboo lineage has finally set ourselves free. If so, then there is no need to continue opening it. Junior thanks Senior. Now, please take back what belongs to you. Then I'll take it. What's in here? What is inside here? This. This, this, this. What's going on? Senior's aura is becoming extremely intense. Ugh. What exactly is happening? Senior, who is within the grave, is trembling with a humongous amount of spiritual energy. Here it comes. It's not only spiritual energy, but she's trying to. 
If such terrifyingly strong spiritual energy is released without restraints into the world, I'm afraid the entire MO6 Danqing Mountain would disappear. I can't let it be. This is the strength of the strongest in Qingzhou. Even the Sword Sovereign's junior brother, Ji Chang Kong, who was like one step away, and Lu Dong Li, who mainly cultivated sensing, did not notice anything happening in the graveyard at the moment. This is the strength of the strongest in Qingzhou. Oh, thank you. I just did what I had to. No need to be so polite with me, senior. I finally remembered something after seeing it. Is the person who passed this thing to you called Lu Li? Lu Li was once mentioned by the 10,000-year-old peach spiritual tree when Lu Chaoga and Jiang Xinyan were in the sword sect trials. He's the last disciple that Emperor Qing took in after the ancient catastrophe. But aside from that identity, he is also. Yes. Lu Li is the founder of our black bamboo forest lineage. That's right. Not only is he a direct disciple of Emperor Qing, but also the first generation sword sovereign. Lu Li, Lu Li, I think I remember now. Why is Senior quiet again? HM, let me sleep for a bit more. Thank you again. All right, this junior shall take his leave then. Oh, I remembered something else as well. Didn't I always say, I'm not that stupid? This isn't what he left for me. It's something he left for him. But he's not home now. H.M., let's wait for his return together then. Chun Chiu Mountain, Main Banquet Hall. Come, let's all toast to welcome Sect Leader Lu. Welcome, Sect Leader Lu. Welcome, Sect Leader Lu. Hey, are they really welcoming me or is this just a farce? Yo, Sect Leader Lu. Since you're a Sect Leader, how many disciples do you have? Nowadays, things are getting really messy. Any random individual of any low background can also just start their own sect and call themselves a sect leader. How dare you? Look up there. Not even your sect leader has spoken yet. Since he didn't speak up to defend me, that means this banquet was meant to put me down in my place. Then, let's leave and not eat this meal. We can't do that. After all, let's see who will be put in their places instead. Since you're offering yourselves to get slapped, then let me give you what you want. Why aren't you answering? Did I hit the mark? Sect Leader Lu is just someone of lowly background who lucked out, right? What I just said isn't so easily brushed aside. You said your sect has many people, but can they compare to our Chun Chiu Mountain? You might offend the higher-ups in our sect too, if you were to ignore it. It means you admit to what I said. Whether or not you answer this, I'll let you have a taste of what it means to snatch Xian Yan away from us. It's unforgivable. To be able to have a drink here, I'm sure you are higher up in Chun Chiu Mountain, right? Sitting in such a high position, yet the things you say are so awful. Isn't this a bit unfitting for your status? How so? A wild chicken will always be a wild chicken. It won't ever become a phoenix. Spiritual wind activated, then, do you mean that sects who have more people are phoenixes, and sects with lesser people are like mountain chickens? Then, according to what I know, Chun Chiu Mountain as a whole only has half the amount of disciples that the sword sect has. So does that mean Qin Zhou's sword sect is a phoenix and Beijo's Chun Chiu Mountain is a mountain chicken? I, I don't mean that. You don't mean that, then were you trying to make things difficult for me then? As the elder of the big four sects in the world, troubling the little sect leader of a sect under Qing Zhou's sword sect? If this were to get spread outside, wouldn't that embarrass Chun Chiu Mountain entirely? I, I, I didn't, that's not. Sect leader, hurry and help me. Oh no, even the sect leader is ignoring me, I'm going to be seen as an abandoned disciple now. Sect Leader Lu, do let him off the hook, please. Chun Chiu Mountain's cultivation technique greatly affect our mental state. This isn't his intentions.
I am Xian Yan's martial aunt. Her master passed away early, so we decided to guide her instead. Grand Elder C.I. Xian, I'll address you as Chao G.E., okay? Of course. I've seen these three people in my past life too. The three Grand Elders with the highest status in Chun Chiu Mountain. They don't care about what happens in the world, but their statuses are higher than the sect leader. Which means they're considered Xian Yan's family. They do say that the uncles and aunts usually like the son-in-law better. I wonder if that's true. This child is the one who took away the flower that is admired and desired by so many in Chun Chiu Mountain. However, since Xian Yan's master passed early, we'll have to watch out for Xian Yan instead. You won't complain and think of us three as annoying, right? Of course not. That's only a natural thing to do. So it seems this is part of the test too. Alright, let's end it here for today. Tomorrow, the three of us will have to give you a hard test. Uh. Alright. I wonder if three elders can at least give me a hint first. Ha ha ha. How can we? Oh, he can even chat with them casually. I guess I was worried for nothing. The Xian Yin is mine. Trying to trouble me? Give it your best shot. Marshal Uncle Lu, Marshal Aunt Jiang, I'm going to see the saint now. Bye. Go ahead. Pei Qian Qian's master is the saint. It is a bit regretful that I didn't get to see her today. Then, shall we leave as well? However, this regret will be eased from our Xian Yan. All right, I'll send you to the guest quarters. Guest quarters, huh? Since we're a couple, isn't it weird for you to go rest at your place and me at the guest quarters? I'll have to go take a look at where you stay. It's healing enough to see her shy side. A lady who can handle so much, can defeat others, can shield her man and still appear so cute. There's nowhere else I can find someone like her. Ahem, ahem, however, there's a limit to teasing her too. I'll have to stop and not make it too hard on her. F follow me. Huh? I, I'm just worried that you'll run into troubles at night, so don't overthink this. It seems like great things are going to happen tonight. Chun Chiu Mountain Jiang Xian Yan's residence. T this is my residence. Hmm. How familiar. It's still the same as my previous life. Except in my previous life, she and I were master disciple. We practiced and trained together, always covered in sweat. But now, we're a martial couple who can fight shoulder to shoulder. He he. Wait. Even if we've reached this place, with my current level, I still won't be able to break through her defenses. Level 61 Identity, Body Refinement and Spear Cultivator, Level 43 Identity, Sword Cultivator. What are you looking at? Looking at where you live, it's as I imagine it to be. Is it the same? Exactly the same. Speaking nonsense again. How could you possibly imagine it the same? Oh ho, isn't this where I lived in my past life? Then you, get some rest early tonight. Ah, uh, we're sleeping separately? We can sleep separately, but you can't leave now. Today, I insist on teasing my master a little in this disciple room. Chun Chiu Mountain behind the mountain the saint's residence. Master, I've returned. You still remember to return? Chun Chiu Mountain Saint. Master, did you finish spending your spiritual stones again? Come on. I came back because I miss my master. Hmm, I've hugged so many martial ants, senior sisters, even martial aunt Jiang, but master's scent is the best. I understand. You really did run out of spiritual stones. Putting aside spiritual stones for now. Master, Chun Chiu Mountain is so rowdy today. Why didn't you come out and take a look? Really? Sigh, I knew it. You have absolutely no interest in anything that isn't pretty. Yes. Whether it's within the mountain or outside of it, there are many pretty things, 
but not many are worth looking at. The ones that are worth my time are even lesser in this mountain. But what if I told you Marshal Uncle Lou came by? He he. Marshal Uncle Lou? Which one? It's Lu Chao Ge. Lu Chao Ge, one of the younger talents of the new generation in Ching Zhou. I remember him now. But why did you call him Marshal Uncle? Because Marshal Aunt Jiang and him are a Marshal couple now. Huh? Really? As expected, only existence that is as pretty as Marshal Aunt Jiang will cause her to have a change in expression. You're too much of a pervert, Master. Of course it's real. Master, let me tell you. Marshal Uncle Lu is really famous in Tianxian world. Not only is his swordsmanship excellent and above many, but there are other reasons too. There's a saying that's spread throughout Qing Zhou, but I don't know if Master has heard of it before. What is it? If you've seen Chao Ge once, your whole life is doomed by him. Really? He he all the rumors in society are just exaggerated. With my identity, what kind of handsome men have I not seen before? You don't believe me? Then how about this, just take a look. Use your heavenly eye technique to just take a look. With just one look, you will definitely understand. If I'm not impressed with this one look, your spiritual stones for this month will be deducted. Although I really like money, but this time, I definitely won't lose. Marshal Uncle Lou's visuals will definitely shock and impress Master. Here it comes. The view is coming up. With Master's heavenly eye technique, no matter where, as long as she can follow after the trace of spiritual energy, she can peek into them in real time. Really useful. Meaninglessly covering face, Aya. Marshal Aunt Jiang, Marshal Uncle Lu. You too, how could you too? To think there's such a beautiful scene in this world. No, even though it's beyond beautiful, this is still their privacy. How can I be so blinded? I can't keep watching. But that scene earlier was so beautiful it took my breath away. Master? Master? Wake up. Master, what happened to you just now? Chien Chien, what you said earlier was right. Ah. Uh, Ah, uh, what did I say right? Which sentence? Sleep in my room tonight, okay? Although I can't break through her defenses yet, but hugging a beauty to sleep is still great. The three elders are still going to give you a test tomorrow. Why are you not taking it seriously? I am serious, very serious about it. So much that I can't put anything else above you. Why you're such a smooth talker. As since you're prepared, let's sleep early. If it's for you, any kind of mountains of daggers and seas of flames, I'd still dive in for you. That black flute is taken by that senior in M.O. sect. I wonder if it's just a coincidence or if it really is fated. I've seen that black flute before. That's the ancestor of our whole lineage. Hurry. Pay your respects. I greet the ancestor. Master, who is that? Why is that his painting is above our ancestor? To him? His identity is, indeed, higher than our ancestor. Someone with higher status than our ancestor. I wonder what kind of person he is. Chin Bin Mountain, Ageless Peak, the elders and seniors who have retired from Chun Chiu Mountain reside in this place. It's also known as the Retirement House of Chun Chiu Mountain. No, that can't be done. All of you are great cultivators. How can you think of bullying a fourth rank, young man like that? Aren't you too shameless? He received the love of junior sister Jiang. Don't you think he deserves this much of trial at least? Yeah. It's not like we're brutes who don't understand logic. Seniors, don't shield Lu Chao Ji so much. Then, let's talk about the ridiculous ideas you've come up. You first, Su Ling Yun. As an elder, you suggested challenging Lu Chao Ji one to one. With your sixth rank cultivation, you want to bully a fourth rank young man. 
Aren't you ashamed, as someone who's above 100 years old? And you, Zhang Chuji? As a deacon, you suggested doing an arm wrestle with Lu Chao Ge. Were you really thinking of doing arm wrestling? You clearly wanted to take the chance to break his hand for good, didn't you? And you, Zhao Zhiqi. As Chun Chiu Mountain's rare few swordsmen, you suggested fighting him with swordsmanship. You're a great cultivator who has activated your domain in swordsmanship. Were you also just thinking of challenging him? Or do you want me to expose you further? If it's going to be an unfair challenge, then there's no point talking about it. Or else, you'll just be shaming us Chun Chiu Mountain. Then, let Lu Chao Ge come on the Chun Chiu stage. Sect leader, why are you here? We greet the sect leader. On the Chun Chiu stage, everyone will be suppressed to the same rank. And furthermore, that's where we settle every conflict in Chun Chiu Mountain. I think there's no better place than that. Three rounds. So three people will be qualified to get on stage. Three elders, please rest assured. This venerable one won't be personally getting on it. The Lu Chao GE now still doesn't have the qualification for that either. Sect leader's suggestion is the most suitable one. Chun Chiu stage. It's the place where we settle all the conflicts in Chun Chiu Mountain. This venerable one can finally teach that brat a good lesson. This is great. Ha ha ha. Using peace to settle all kinds of disputes, Chun stage, how is this fair? You're all trying to make it difficult for Lu Chao Ge. Although the ranks will be suppressed on the Chuenqiu stage, the great cultivators are still superior to Lu Chao Ge, who's only at fourth rank now in terms of experience, comprehension, and combat skills. But my Chun Chiu Mountain's cultivation method amplifies one's desire. If I blindly suppress and interfere with it, I'm afraid they may go overboard. Sigh. This kid, Hang In, still hasn't escaped from the word love after all. Xian Yin, what exactly do I lack compared to him? Chun Chiu Mountain is considered one of the four strongest sects in the world. More so the saint and sect leader are considered the strongest cultivators. Fellow senior and junior brothers and sisters, you have to train well. Our future is in your hands. When I just entered Chun Chiu Mountain, I was young, brave, and talented. But that was also my first time seeing you. You were like the ice snow flower. Unobtainable, cold, and unapproachable. The winner is Hang In. Whoa. Junior brother Hang In won't lose as expected. Senior brother Hang In is so amazing. Maybe he'll be the sect leader's successor. Senior brother Hang In, look at me. However, you didn't even spare me a glance. Therefore, I trained even harder. I cultivated even harder. I improved myself and climbed even way up to a higher position. I thought that if I was stronger and brighter, you would have no choice but to look at me one day. Just like other junior and senior sisters, you will take notice of me. However, you didn't. I became even angrier. I want to climb to the very top of Chun Chiu Mountain. I want to be the first among the newbies. I'll make it so that you can't ignore my existence. Until that senior sister stands in front of me. Because of her existence, I knew I wouldn't be able to stand at the top. I had no more way to make you look at me even once. Sigh. Want a sip? Yet, at the most painful moment in my life, where I was at my lowest. You showed up again. See, can I? Give it back if you don't want it. Cough, cough, cough. Cough. This tastes so weird. Cough. This is my favorite summer sleep alcohol. It does taste different from normal alcohol. I'm leaving. You can continue sitting here. Wait. Junior sister Jay Jiang. What? W.Y. did you offer me alcohol? Nothing much. I just acted out of pleasure. Acting out of pleasure to think you're such a carefree and cool person. Should I ask? Won't it be too hasty if I do? 
but if I don't ask, when will I ever know her intentions? I must ask. Hung in. Don't back down. You're hung in. The hung in that can do anything. T that. T that, junior sister J. Jiang. Just say it. Don't be so hesitant. I, I. Do, do you like me? No, ah. Uh. If there's nothing else, I'll be leaving. Then what kind of man do you like? Now that's an interesting question. I don't know either. But if there really is such a person like that existing in this world, then the moment I see him, perhaps I would know. So, you've met that person now, right? But I'm not happy. Even if it's seen as bullying the weak, I'll still not let him go easily. Because I'm not happy. Senior sister, you here at this time, right? Are you going to be involved in Lu Chao Ge's matter this time too? You followed me for a long time. You're not going to show yourself? Come out. I know you're there. Since you're not coming out, then I'm leaving. Why are you so impatient all the time? Is it because junior sister Jiang brought back her Taoist partner to the mountain and it hurt you, unity of heaven and humanity? You yourself know better. If you're here to advise me, then lay off. I won't personally be fighting Lu Chao Ge after all. Since he doesn't have qualification for it. I haven't even said anything, don't pin it on me yet. I actually think it's a pretty good suggestion to bring up the Chun Chiu stage for him. After all, the people in our mountain all talk about desires and love. Since we can't talk using words, we'll do it through fighting. But senior sister, you never care about anything outside the world. Why would you be so concerned this time for one person? Is it because he's junior sister John's Taoist partner? Yes, but also no. Then, senior sister, did you see his appearance already? Yes. Everyone at Chun Chiu Mountain knows that I lust. His beauty is close to being incomprehensible. And I can't hold back. Just because he looks good, you're getting involved? Just because he's good looking? Yep, because he's good looking. But you must understand, he's junior sister John's partner. So what? Beautiful things are fine with being admired. But they don't have to be owned. Then what else is there to say? I'm leaving. Then we've an agreement. I'll be there tomorrow. Humph. Now then, I have something to do too. It's morning. She's so charming even when she's asleep. Go ahead if you want to pinch it. I'll definitely run into some troubles today. Are you worried? It's nothing much for this venerable one. He, he you two are finally out. Did you sleep well last night? Of course. Now, did the three elders finish discussing what my test will be like? Let's talk along the way. The seniors discussed about your test last night. It'll be at Chun Chiu stage. Chun Chiu stage? Is it suitable? Chun Chiu stage? I'm freaking familiar with it. Chun Chiu stage, it's where everyone settles every conflict on Chun Chiu mountain using the most traditional method. People who know, know. The ones who play games, it's where people with the same enemies bond together to attack at the same time without stopping. Back then, I was constantly here fighting people. Sometimes, I had to drop by multiple times a day. It's basically my second home. On Chun Chiu stage, your rank will be suppressed to the same level. Sometimes, your spiritual energy might get drained to nothing since it's way lower, and you have to resort to using bare hands and physical strength. I also know it's not suitable. All the elders in the sect are sixth rank and above. No matter how you look at it, it's really bullying the weak. Since the higher-ups have decided on it, what use is there if I think it's not suitable? I think it's very suitable. 
Thank you, Eldersia, for leading the way. All right, all right. Sect Leader Lu, Junior Sister Jiang, come with me, please. Chun Chiu Mountain, Chun Chiu Stage. Waiting sternly. Sect Leader, I've brought Sect Leader Lu over. Lu Chao Ge, let this venerable one see how strong you really are to have stolen Xian Yan's heart. Sect Leader, you are the one who wants to get on the stage the most, right? Senior Elder C.I. X.I.N. Tai, please start. All right. Our people in Chun Chiu Mountain are smart, strong, and carry themselves well. We are overjoyed by the fact that Lu from the M.O. sect and Jiang from our Chuenqiu have become a Taoist couple. However, to obtain the pearl of our sect, you will have to go through the test of Chun Chiu stage. Half an hour later, therefore, we need three people for today's test. Disregarding life or death, most importantly, it's a matter of winning or losing. However, it's hard to hold back during a battle. So both sides should take more caution. No using underhanded tactics, no battling to the death, no. How long is she going to read the rules? Senior Elder C.I. X.I.N. Tai magnified her desire to talk, so she really likes giving speeches. Be a bit more patient. Another half an hour later, therefore, the test battle involving Lu Chao G.E. today will officially begin. Thank you, Senior. Leave the rest to me. Too long. If there was already an actual fight and someone had died, she'd still be going. All right, this is now the world of you young ones. Yes, yes. Please leave quickly, take care. The long-ass crap that Senior Elder C.I. X.I.N. Tai said earlier can be concluded in one sentence. There'll be three matches, and the ones who wish to challenge me will line up, and then I'll be the one to choose my opponent. For the first match, who should I choose? X.I.N. Yin is watching me. Then I have to choose an easy opponent for the first match. Everyone, can I know who wants to spar with me this round? Me? Me too. I'd like to as well. Humph. Oh, Zhao Ji Qi. He's the famous traitor of the sect. But things haven't been exposed yet. H.M. Lu Chao Ji. You killed this venerable one's Moonlight Snow Wolf King. That's an ancient demonic beast belonging to me. How dare you? If you were to choose me, I'll let you pay with your blood. I'll choose you then. Me? Well, it's you who chose me yourself. Don't complain when you die. Sect Leader Lu, it's my honor to be your opponent. How old-fashioned. All villains always take the gentleman route. However, it's great to choose him since there's no repercussions. Everyone present here is from Xian Yan's side. It wouldn't be good to beat up anyone. But for him, it's fine. Since he'll die in the future anyways. After all, dead people can't hold grudges. Plus he's the villain too, so there's no need to hold back. Who knows if I were to beat him up a bit more now, I'd even gain more experience points for the Beijo main plot mission. So, wouldn't he make the best choice? We're both swordsmen, Sect Leader Lu. I wonder whether it's Qingzhou's sword or Beijo's sword that is sharper and faster. Although all four sects have their own main cultivation weapon, there will always be people who choose the unconventional route. For example, this Zhao Ji Qi who learned swordsmanship in Chun Chiu Mountain where people practiced spear. Truly different. My cultivation rank is 6th rank, 8th heavenly layer. May I request for the sect leader to cast a binding spell on me so that my rank is lowered to fourth rank, third heavenly layer of like sect leader Lu? Okay. Sixth rank, fifth heavenly layer, fifth rank, second heavenly layer, fourth rank, third heavenly layer. The rank limit has been set. Begin. Be careful now, sect leader Lu. System, analyze his sword intent level. Zap Ji Qi, Sword Intent Level, Level 4. Level 4, it's the same as mine. He's at 4th rank, yet his Sword Intent is the same level as me. What a strange thing. 
I've never heard of anyone having level 4 sword intent at 4th rank. It seems like I can't win against him with just sword intent. I have to use that. My chi condensing technique and slowed sound are the best techniques to buff myself. And my next move, unlimited critical hits basic attacks. How will you deal with this? Something's wrong. His sword attacks seem to have gotten twice as heavy as before. I have already refined my sword aura to the strongest, yet I can only barely defend against his slashes, with no chance to counterattack at all. I can't believe Senior Brother Zhao Zhiqi is at a disadvantage. Brother Zhao Zhiqi is a true 6th rank expert. His battle techniques and experience should be above that of Lu Chao Ge. No, if you observe closely, that Lu Chao Ge's sword intent is also at the 4th level. What? He's only 4th rank. But his sword intent is at that level? After 6th rank, all cultivators will awaken a power that is way beyond 5th rank. At Chao Ge's present state, this power should not be possible to attain. And that power is domain, the biggest difference between the 6th and 5th rank. Once it is activated, Chao Ge you must exercise extreme caution. Sect Leader Lu, I am going to get serious. Oh? Are you finally going to use abilities beyond 4th rank? This Zhao will borrow your swords. Sword Domain My sword? My sword seems to have a mind of its own. It's going to fly away. I can't believe it. Can something be this cool? Swords Gather It's coming. Zhao Zhiqi Sword Domain. Chao Ge you have to be careful. He really used domain, this Zhao Zhiqi is really not afraid of being labeled as someone that bullies the weak. Humph. The methods are not important as long as they bring victory. Zhao Zhiqi might win this time, but using this method to win has really brought shame to Chun Chiu Mountain. Gather swords? Are you even worthy? Sword Heart Using spiritual thread to forcefully drag in other people's swords, what kind of sex sword gathering technique is this? The real way to gather swords for yourself is when they are expecting you, expecting you to use them. Just like how I can feel the water in the surroundings, they are currently awaiting my command. I is this the power of heaven and earth? To be able to control the ice and snow, could this power be the power of water? All of you are ignorant. According to rumors, Sect Leader Lu is the first to awaken the power of water and triggered the Heavenly Order nine times. Well then, I will borrow the snow. This, what is this? Power of water. All these ice swords must be Lu Chao Ge's power of water. This strong presence is not weaker than the Sword of Clouds which sliced the icy fields. Hurry, hurry. Hurry up and record damn it. Didn't you want to scare me? Then I will scare you even more. Let's see if your ice swords are stronger, or if my flying swords are stronger. Go! I didn't hold back at all in this move. If any of these hundreds of swords were to fly the wrong way, or go in the wrong course, and accidentally pierce your heart, then that is what you deserve. Go! Who won this move? Chao Ji. Huff, 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 I it was a tie. Brother Zhao's move is inferior to Lu Chao Ji's. Ji Qi has fallen to a lower standard. All the swords he swiped are all stolen and coerced. Meanwhile, Lu Chao Ji's ice sword showcased his remarkable precise control over the powers of heaven and earth. His power of water is incredibly ingenious, way above the level in which Qian Qian uses the power of lightning. I, sect leader, you are comparing me with Marshal Uncle Lu. I am a junior, while Marshal Uncle Lu is a senior, and Marshal Uncle Lu isn't even human, but a monster and an abomination. To compare me with him, isn't it actually a compliment? Yup, yup, Marshal Uncle Lu is amazing. A tie? This is impossible. Maya's word domain is not like your fragile snowflake. What level are you to be worthy of drawing with me? You are from the lowest sect among the 300 sects under the sword sect, M.O. Sect Sect Leader, that's all. All these swords can still listen to my orders. Go! 
You, a third-rate sect leader, don't even qualify to speak to me. Not good. He knows that Chao Ge has expended a large amount of spiritual energy to use the power of heaven and earth, whereas he can control other swords to launch unlimited attacks. Furthermore, Chao Ge will definitely not damage those forcefully stolen swords from the cultivators of Chun Chiu Mountain. He has caught his weakness. Chao Ge, what will you do? With his abilities at fourth rank, he should be unable to use the ice swords attack again. Zhao Jiqi will take this opportunity of weakness to strike. With this attack, how will Lu Chao Ge defend against it? All these swords are the main swords of the Chen Qiu Mountain members. If they are destroyed, it would offend the entire Chen Qiu Mountain. So, how will you break through this? This sword domain is really useful using other swords for your own matters, no compensation even when damaged, and making me take the blame. It's a pity that Yu Zhao Ji Qi aren't working in real estate. What does this mean? He kept his sword, is he going to surrender? Yes, yes, in the face of a sky filled with swords, his spiritual energy is surely not enough to make use of his move before again. In the end, he lost because his rank is too low. No, he won't lose. Even if he were to lose, he would not stand still and be defeated. He will never surrender. Sword heart, heart since you want to play with petty tricks, I will set the tables then. Break. The swords flee? What happened? Could it be that what Lu Chao Ge cut is senior brother Zhao's domain? What is happening? What is going on? Why is my domain not working? What did Lu Chao Ge do? Could it be some spiritual soul technique? Chun Chiu Mountain fully focuses on body cultivation. If he knows spiritual soul techniques, then that is the perfect counter to Chun Chiu Mountain. Congratulations, seniors. All of you guessed correctly. Back when Marshal Uncle Lu Ge managed to advance his innate ability, I was shocked for a long while. Chao Ji, you do have a way. I used to think that Sister Jiang was conned, but from what I see now, this appearance of such a handsome and talented young man is very hard to come by. I'm so envious of Sister Jiang. Where did she go to encounter such a talented and perfect gentleman? Not bad. It looks like in the sword path, Lu Chao Ge is far superior than Ji Qi. What in the world happened? How did my domain get broken? HM? Blood? Why am I bleeding? Because your domain was broken and your spiritual soul suffered damage. If you still don't understand, I can help you. It's my spiritual soul. He actually cut my spiritual soul, asshole. You lost. So what if you've got a hundred swords? One sword, one person, that is enough for me. Lu Chao Ji, one. Ah. My sword has returned. Whoa. My sword. Mine has come back too. Too bad we can't enter to spectate. It was a great match. Likewise. Lu Chao Ji, just you wait. It looks like our sex disciples are very curious about sect leader Lu, and more and more people are gathering outside Chun Chiu stage. Then let us remove the restriction and allow the sect disciples to enter. Hurrah! Aya! Eh! Stop pushing! Stop pushing! Aya! Why was the restriction removed? Does this mean we are allowed to enter and spectate? Awesome, now we no longer have to eavesdrop outside the door. To let the disciples enter? Then if we lose, then as elders and masters, where do we even put our faces? The sect leader really wants us to fight Lu Chao Ge to the death. Ayo. Stop squeezing. I'm about to be squashed. Damn it. Don't squeeze to my front, squeeze to the back. Whoa. It's Lu Chao Ge. It's the live Lu Chao Ge. Quick, record. Good grief. It's my turn to go viral. It's starting, it's starting. Beep. 
Recording started. Beep. Recording started. The forum would probably blow up by now. Lu Chao Ge won the first match against Elder Zhao Ji Qi. Who would be the second opponent? Originally, I thought that there would be no audience, but here comes the audience. I wonder how many players are hidden within the crowd. How many human-sized recorders are there? This venerable one's reputation, how many levels will it rise? Spiritual wind activated. To have so many people enter all at once, the next elder that Chao Ge challenges will definitely give it their all. After all, no one wishes to lose their face in front of the disciples. Senior brother Hang In, will you really go so far? Junior sister Jiang is looking at me. She seems slightly angry. She's angry, but I'm still angry too. HMP. Not even a word of greeting, and she brought back an outsider claiming to be her lover. Who can accept this? In actual fact, except for Hang In, everyone in Chun Chiu Mountain seems to be able to accept it. Since sect leader Lu needs a moment to recover, I will give you a blue heart pill, which can help you recover your spiritual energy. They even started to offer supplements as gifts. Thank you for your concern, but I won't need it for now. After all, senior brother Zhao Ji Qi didn't cause too much trouble for me. Fine, fine, fine. You just have to embarrass me in front of the crowd, huh? Once I get the chance, I will definitely kill you. Senior Brother Zhao, be willing to accept defeat. If I find out you will do something unscrupulous to my Chao Ji, I don't mind going to the Chun Chiu stage to have a round with you, Senior Brother Zhao. Sister Jiang, surely you jest. I almost forgot that this guy has Xian Yin supporting him. This woman can't be offended. She is the only monster that was able to take the deacon position at just fifth rank. Furthermore, this monster has already broken through the sixth rank. All right. In that case, Chao Ji, please select a new opponent. Yes, let me pick my next opponent. Zhao Ji Qi is one of the stronger ones among us. Looking at Lu Chao Ji's talent, it seems that it would be easy for him to grab the victory in the next rounds. With so many disciples watching, who would want to lose their reputation? Don't pick me, don't pick me. You can't see me, you can't see me. How lame, there's so many people but not one is raising their head. Except for that one woman. But this is not the time. Furthermore, in this place, the one that wants to get on the stage the most isn't even here, he's right there. He is the man that wants to be on this stage the most. In this moment, two outstanding individuals had eye contact. It can't be. It can't be. Lu Chao Ge is looking at the sect leader. Both of them even smiled. Could it be? Holy moly, Lu Chao Ge, how dare he? Chao Ge, you, what are you thinking? He is at the peak of 8th rank. MO Sex Lu Chao Ge, hereby request Chen Chiu Mountain sect leader Hang In to enlighten me. A S salute. A salute from a sword cultivator. This is asking for defeat. Will the sect leader accept this challenge? It can't be. Sect leader Lu is really crazy. Ha ha ha. Fine, fine. This vulnerable one will accept. Sect leader accepted. Eighth rank versus fourth rank. This, this. How is it possible for him to win? You must know that even if my rank is suppressed to be the same as yours, you will never defeat me. Of course I know, but I really want to fight you the most here. You should know that, apart from the saint and her equals among the four great sects, no one is my opponent. Not even Ji Chang Kong, who taught you once. So what? In other words, this venerable one is the fifth strongest in the world. So what? So what? So what? So what? OMG. OMG, it's coming. The legendary scene of the century. This is Lu Chao Ge. The real and authentic Lu Chao Ge. You can't fake this. So cool. Being cool is enough. 
Even if he is beaten to death today by an 8th rank, sect leader Lu will freaking make his death be the coolest. Chao Ge is too reckless. The sect leader is at 8th rank. He's smiling, he's smiling. So that's what it is, I understand, I understand. He's using this method to have our relationship be set in stone. There are many in Chun Chiu Mountain that like me, but to be willing to stand on Chun Chiu stage against the sect leader for me, there is only one person Lu Chao Ge. So Junior's sister John's heart was really stolen by him. But to be brave enough to openly challenge me is indeed extraordinary. Not many people are able to even look directly at me. Maybe. Junior's sister Jiang has discovered the type of man she likes. From the moment I see him, perhaps I would know. Lu Chao Ge, the difference between you and I is too large. If you can defend against three of my moves, I will count it as your win. Three moves. The level in my previous life in the game was only level 60, but the stats of a level 60 are enough to smash a level 40 in one hit. After all, no matter if it's a level 60 sword intent, techniques, or domain, they are all overwhelmingly superior to a level 40s. If I guessed correctly, this Hangin wants to give me a good beating. Did I say too much? After all, I am at 8th rank. If I do not defeat him in three moves, wouldn't the whole world think that I'm very weak? But I really want to beat him. He stole my junior sister Jiang away. If I don't give him a beating, I'll never forgive myself. The sect leader actually wants to launch three attacks at a fourth rank? Is he trying to kill him? It's better if he finishes Lu Chao Ge in one hit, because if Lu Chao Ge manages to survive the three moves, what would happen to the reputation of Chu Chiu Mountain? If he manages to survive, then Chun Chiu Mountain would essentially be increasing the status of the little MO sect for free. No matter the results, after the battle, the reputation of MO sect will rise rapidly. Three moves. A level 40 plus sect leader Lu tanking three moves from the level 80 plus sect leader. Can he survive? Even if he can't tank it, he is still able to see the skills of a level 80. That is so worth it. Shut up. My bro Lu Chao Ge can definitely tank it. Fine, three moves. Good, I will give you a joust stick worth of resting time to recover, so you would be at your best state to face this venerable one. You have the guts, I like it. No need, just give me ten breaths. Are you kidding? Fourth rank, third heavenly layer, fourth rank, fourth heavenly layer, fourth rank, fifth heavenly layer. 4th rank, 6th heavenly layer. 4th rank, 7th heavenly layer, I'm done. He, he broke through. Breaking through 7 stages at once. Is he still human? Have you been intentionally suppressing your cultivation? To break through 7 stages at once. It's impossible unless he is suppressing his levels. I suppose you could say that. Saving experience points and not using them is technically suppressing my level, so there's no issue there. No wonder, your foundation is very stable, it is the most stable I have ever seen. There is no one below 5th rank that is your match. My diehard fans in the live stream, did you hear that? Lu Chao Ge is unmatched below rank 5. My family, did you hear? Sect leader Lu is unrivaled. My dear friends, you heard it right. It's all true. Lu Chao Ge is the world number one. He is even stronger than the saint and sword sovereign. Chun Chiu Mountain Sect leader said so himself. My fans said they already heard it and told me to shut up and not disturb them watching the battle. I got it worse. They said I'm a blind monk, a messenger of the deaf. Bro, you got off easy. My friends here are all reporting my live stream, saying that I'm committing online fraud. To be able to gain the Chun Chiu Mountain Sect leader's approval is my honor. Now unleash your move. You will know that I want to be number one not just below fifth rank, but in the entire Tian Xian. He's just like this, this kind of strong spirit and metal. Isn't it already the world's strongest? Well then, let this venerable one test the strength of the future world number one. 
you better defend yourself well. After all, this is just one strike from this fourth rank, seventh heavenly layer venerable. As expected of one of the world's strongest, this one simple palm strike makes me feel like I am crushed under a mountain. But, so what? This, this palm strike does not contain any other skills. It is just one simple ordinary strike. Moreover, the sect leader has restricted his rank to fourth rank, seventh heavenly layer. The sect leader's power is indeed so superior. Not even I dare to steal his thunder. Even though the sect leader did not use any techniques in this palm strike, the power has far exceeded beyond the usual sixth rank. If I were to take this strike head on, I will definitely die. Definitely. Burnt to crisp. He's still standing? Such a ferocious move didn't strike him down. This guy is really talented to be able to take the sect leader's strike. Chao Ji. Again. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. 666, this is too cool. Lu Chao Ge is indeed my husband. My man is so brilliant. No, no, no. If that handsome dude over there damages my husband's face, I will fight him. Awesome, awesome. Lu Chao Ge, world number one, who agrees with me. Not bad, that strike just now was one where even a normal peak 5th rank won't be able to take it, but you're still standing. This venerable one is impressed. But the next strike will be one where even a peak 6th rank would have trouble tanking. Be careful now. The flames from this palm strike are no longer triggered by my spiritual energy, but... Heaven and Earth Resonance This, this is Heaven and Earth Resonance. He used a terrifying amount of heat to burn the entire area straight into a vacuum. There's not even oxygen left to breathe. My entire body feels like it is in a lava core. If not for my power of water defending me automatically, I would have immediately turned into ashes. So this is the power you get at 8th rank. Very powerful, very powerful indeed. Analyzing top rank skill heaven and earth resonance. That Lu Chao Ge is now, is he going to die? Impossible. What kind of attack is that? Th looks like the winner is clear. That is heaven and earth resonance. Hang Yin actually used that skill. This is guaranteed death for normal 6th rank. Chao Ji. Marshal Ant Jiang, don't be rash. Calm down. That bastard wants to take the life of Chao Ji. How can I remain calm? D don't be hasty, look closely at Marshal Uncle Lu. Chao Ji Yi he's. Eh? He's actually taking this move? That's right, Marshal Uncle Lu will definitely find a way to break through. My goodness, this almost caused a civil war within the sect. Marshal Aunt Jiang actually called the sect leader a bastard, I wonder if he heard her. Don't tell me. He actually. Huff, huff. Lu Chao Ge is fine. He is indeed capable. That was close. I almost thought my beloved bro was going to die. If Lu Chao Ge dies, I will delete all my saves and run away. But he actually broke through this move. I can't believe it. Again. Looks like I have to get serious. Spear name Nirvana. For Hang Yin to use the Nirvana, there are no cultivators in the fourth rank that are as strong as Lu Chao Ge in this world. Your sword seems to only attack and not retreat. Very interesting. But my spear does not retreat as well. Well then, attack. Chao Ge seems to be seriously injured. Good, let's see if you can handle my 8th level spear spirit. So hot, is this the sect leader's real strength? This is too much, is this the flame flame fruit? Lu Chao Ge has water. Can water counter such a terrifying fire? How should Lu Chao Ge deal with this? 
Hung Yin spear enveloped in eight layers of spear spirit, with my current level, I definitely can't tank this. But as the one chosen by the heavens, there is always a way for the chosen one to break through. This slash would be no less than the slash I sealed for ten years. Watch yourself. To change the colors of earth and sky. Just how strong is this spear spirit? As expected of the world's second strongest spears man, only inferior to the saint's presence. If we were facing this spear, how would we, Hang Yin really gave no mercy, the eighth level of spear spirit. A normal fourth rank would be dead immediately. If something happens to Lu Chao Ji Yi on Chun Chiu Mountain, the sword sect will definitely come after us. Should we stop it? No need. After all, as long as she's here, nothing will go wrong. Ha ha ha. I have been unrivaled in my rank for too long. What I wanted was this kind of powerful opponent. This feels good. This feels so good. Chao Ji. Marshal Uncle Lu. This feels good, so good. Again. Ha ha ha. This venerable one said three moves and has made the said three moves. There is no need to fight any longer. The victor hasn't been decided yet. Chao Ji. Stop. This is enough. The fifth move. Slowed sound serious slash. Humph. You win. I lost. The sect leader gave the victory to Lu Chao Ji. But Lu Chao Ji said that he lost. So who won and who lost? You have no more spiritual energy left. I know. I have made five moves, so you won. But the goal I had set was actually to withstand ten of your moves. Catch. You can't withstand ten of my attacks yet, but you will definitely be able to in the future. This is a medicine to heal my injuries. What did Hang Yin mean by this? So live on with your life in the future. If Junior Sister Jiang were to complain to me that you'd bullied her, humph, I will smash you so hard you would be picking your teeth off the floor. This old guy. Two victories out of three matches since Lu Chao Ge had already won twice, I hereby announce. Chao Ge won, but his arms seemed to be severely injured, as expected of Marshal Uncle Lu. He, he actually won against the sect leader. This, this, Lu Chao Ge actually won. Lu Chao Ge defeated the Chun Chiu Mountain sect leader. The strongest beneath the fifth rank, Lu Chao Ge. To me, this is a golden opportunity. I would like to continue on with the third match. He still wants to fight. Indeed, he is different from everyone here. What does he want? There's no one there. What does he mean? He has even defeated the sect leader, who else in Chun Chiu Mountain could? M.O. Sex Lu Chao Ge, please enlighten me. Did he go insane? Did he knock his head? There's, there's not a single soul there. As expected, these guys can't see her. There is only one person in Chun Chiu Mountain that can achieve such a feat. He, he. The saintess that has stepped into the realm of unity of heaven and humanity. Saint. It's the saint. Why did the saint suddenly appear here? It's the ability of unity of heaven and humanity. Senior sister is up to mischief again. We greet the saint. We greet the saint. Is he crazy? Oh heavens, it's not enough that he finished off the sect leader, but he is going after the saintess too. Something's wrong with Lu Chao Ge's brain. It's over, it's all over, Marshal Uncle Lu is totally insane. How could he be master's opponent? Chao Ge desires stronger opponents. He wants to learn even more from them. Lu Chao Ge, compared to seeing him through the heavenly eye technique, his real appearance is much more good looking. 
His current appearance is so close to the Tao. This is the saint. Unity of heaven and humanity is not only a realm, but it can also change one's appearance. Even though she is not extremely beautiful, her beauty will still ensnare others the more they look at it. The extraordinary mutual attraction between unity of heaven and humanity and level 10 charm. You are hurt and your spiritual energy is almost depleted. It's just a small injury and I can still break through. Huh? What did Lu Chao Ge just say? He said he can still break through. I is he a human or a monster? The battle with that guy Hang Yin just now was merely a battle. It did not activate effective guidance. All beings are equal. For top experts at 8th rank like Ji Chang Kong, Hang Yin and the Saintess, if they gave advice to instruct me, the system will automatically consider them as effective guidance. This way, I will be able to get some exceptional rewards for free. Since I didn't manage to freeload from Chun Chiu Mountain Sect Leader, I must definitely take this chance to freeload from Chun Chiu Mountain Saint. Your injuries are too severe. They ruined your beautiful aesthetic. I see. The Saint is also a healer. HM, now it's perfect. Oh shit, I got targeted by a monster for my looks. What should I do? This person only cares about my appearance. It's over, it's over, Master's fetish for beauty is running rampant once again. I cannot defeat you if I suppress myself to your rank. For this third match, I will just give you the win. She casually said such a major thing. Lu Chao Ge is indeed very powerful. The saintess actually said those words, I isn't she implying that Lu Chao Ge will exceed her in the future. Oh my god. Perhaps we will battle one day. It shouldn't be here, and it shouldn't be now. The saintess left? She just left like that? The strongest in Beijou versus Qing Zhou's strongest of the younger generation. What an interesting scene. It's a shame, a shame I say. Whoa. I really want to see them fight. Did you all notice that the saintess is really beautiful? I know, right? It's so different from those influences that use the beauty filters. Lu Chao Ge is the most handsome. The saintess is so pretty. My husband is also very handsome. Before leaving Chun Chiu Mountain, I must freeload off of her once. Then this trip will be worthwhile. Chao Ge. Quickly, let me see if your injuries are serious. Relax, I'm all right. Um, your injuries have all been healed by the saintess, but your body is still devoid of spiritual energy. You need to slowly recover. Sect leader, martial ants, I will take Chao Ge back to recuperate. Go. Junior sister Jiang is glaring at me. Martial ant Jiang, wait up. Wait for me. Why do I feel like more and more of them are helping an outsider? Martial ant Jiang, wait for me. My wife is so soft. Her scent is so nice. Why is she angry? Lu Chao Ge. What do you think you are doing? All you had to do was withstand three of his moves, and instead you attacked him too. Do you have no concern for your health? I'm sorry, I got too caught up in the moment. Caught up in the moment? So you no longer want your life? So what if you lose? Even if you lost, you still have me. If you lose, then so be it. I know, but for your sake, I can't lose too. If I'd lost, others would say that you loved the wrong guy, or that you found a useless man. I don't want it to be like that. I, I know. But I didn't expect the saintess to have such a technique. With a wave of her fingers, all of my wounds were immediately healed, so this is also an ability of the unity of heaven and humanity realm. Marshal Aunt Jiang, I'm here. My embarrassing words didn't reach this girl's ears, did they? Chien Chien, perfect timing. Did you tell the saint about the situation with the heavenly secret tower? Of course I did. Am I a person with a bad memory in Marshall Uncle Lu's mind? Then what did the saint say? Master didn't really say much, but she said she will take note of it. That's all? That's all she said. Yesterday, 
After I let Master use her heavenly eye technique to peep at Marshall Uncle Lou, she kept lapsing into an infatuated trance. Every time I talked to her, she would just answer, H.M., ah, uh, oh. Then, does the saint know the true identity of the tower head? I got so engrossed in peeping at the kiss between Marshall Aunt Jiang and marital Uncle Lou with my master that I've completely forgotten about it. What did the saint say about the identity of the tower head? What should I do? What should I do? If I say that I'd forgotten about it, I will definitely leave a bad impression in Marshall Uncle Lou's heart. But if I don't tell the truth, the situation will get even worse. Eh, is there such a thing? I might have forgotten about it, eh? A laugh that is self-conceited but honest, silly, and a little cute at the same time. Since it has come to this, it's better if I tell the truth, Hayes. Ah. As expected, they gave an expression that says this child is completely unreliable, ah. The good impression that Marshall Uncle Lou had of me is gone. In that case, don't forget about it in the future. Or, let me have the opportunity to meet with the saint. Okay, okay, okay. Marshall Uncle Lou didn't blame me at all. This must mean that in his heart, his impression of me didn't deteriorate that much. Woohoo! How could I miss the chance to freeload some effective guidance won from these 8th rank experts? Once I get the chance, I will ask you, you to visit the Sword Sovereign and freeload off everyone equally. However, it wasn't as troublesome as Lu Chao GE thought to freeload advice off of the Sword Sovereign. If he had stayed in MO Sect, he would have been able to get effective guidance from the Sword Sovereign directly. Little Li Zi, my senior brother isn't as smart as I am, so he doesn't like to instruct others. All of you have to listen closely to his teachings. Even if it's you, you, he would only receive three lessons per year from this old brat. Even the Sword Sovereign's disciple only gets three lessons per year from the Sword Sovereign himself. And the Sword Sovereign is actually here right now giving us a lesson. Annoying Grandpa is so impressive to think that the Sword Sovereign Grandpa actually listens to Annoying Grandpa. Haha, <laughs> not instructing others is my personal habit and teaching you you three times per year is my principle. But if I don't instruct these kids from M.O. Sect, Junior Brother is going to be mad again. And if Junior Brother is angry, what is the point of my principles anymore? That's why, making Junior Brother happy is above all principles. Besides, after a few rounds of teachings, I have discovered some abnormal things. For example, this kid cannot be taught. No matter how I teach him, he doesn't make any improvement. All my efforts are like throwing stones into an ocean. How in the world did this kid manage to reach the fourth rank? What kind of effort did Lu Chao GE spend on him? This kid is really interesting. She's naturally gifted and can grasp my teachings immediately. Her aura of luck is not thin at all. Combining all these traits, it looks like little Chio will definitely become a main pillar of MO sect in the future. As for this child, everything about her is just slightly better than an ordinary disciple. It's just that occasionally, she emits a mysterious power of charm. Finally for this kid, he bears an overwhelming amount of luck, but it seems like he is just about to absorb all the luck into himself. After all, I am Ching Zhou's greatest luck. Cough. Dong Fong. Third junior brother. Senior brother. Give him space quickly. He is about to take all the luck into his body. I will protect him. Even though Senior Brother isn't as powerful as me and all of Ching Zhou, there is nothing he can't do. My disciple, everything will be all right. All of heaven and earth's luck in this body, could it be that this child will become a human sovereign? But all that is for the future. I have to help him get through this first. Ah. This child is absorbing my spiritual energy. T this is the aura of a breakthrough. Dong Fong is breaking through at a rapid speed. That great luck has completely merged with him. 
Third rank, first heavenly layer, luck 10, evaluation, a child of luck that defies heaven, all the luck in this world has been imbued into this body. There is a new notification, would you like to open it? A. Eh? Open it. Your sect rank up mission has been completed, would you like to upgrade to a seventh rank sect? The sect rank up mission was only missing one more third rank disciple. I wonder which kid was so hardworking. Once I get back, I definitely have to reward him well. In that case, rank up. Quick, look at the sky. Why are storm clouds gathering on this clear day? How uneducated, you call these simply storm clouds. This is clearly an oppressive wave of collisionous gloomy clouds. This, this visual effect, is someone going to get struck by lightning? Did the MO sect overdo it too much and the heavens can't take it anymore? No, that's impossible. If that is the case, sect leader Lu would have been smited a long time ago. Look, the dark clouds are swirling. Ah, my skirt. Damn it. I tailored my skirt slit way too high. Everything is going to be exposed. Ah, no, no. Don't blow away my skirt. Rank 7 Sect MO Sect has upgraded to a Rank 7 Sect. This magnificent sight can only be seen by players. Congratulations, your current Sect, MO Sect, has successfully been upgraded to Rank 7. Congratulations, your current Sect, MO Sect, has successfully been upgraded to Rank 7. Rank 7, we've actually ranked up to Rank 7. We've become Rank 7 in such a short time. Ha ha ha, the sect upgraded itself without us having to do anything. Our future sect missions will give more experience points now. My mother doesn't have to worry about me not having any missions anymore. Everyone, don't celebrate too early. Why? Because the next ranking day for the subordinate sects of the sword sect, that would be the day MO sect will truly take flight. We will burst out of the bottom 100 sects at one go. When that happens, the resources, the prestige, the additional bonuses will be beyond our comprehension. Whoa! Sect rank up, rank 7, mission has been completed. Would you like to receive your rewards? Rewards, 1 million experience points, 1 swordsmanship talent upgrade point. What can I do with just 1 million experience points? How is this enough? This swordsmanship upgrade, this is what this venerable one really wants. If I level up my swordsmanship out of the blue, both of them will probably die out of fright. Since I am part of this world, I should do things their way. Xian Yin, Qian Qian, protect me, I have a sudden enlightenment. Spiritual wind activated. You enlightened, just like that? This is ridiculous, way too ridiculous. All I did was mess up something minor, and Marshall Uncle Lou got enlightened? In that case, if I were to mess up something big, wouldn't Marshall Uncle Lou? Chow Ji's enlightenment, is it from the battle with Hung In? If that's the case, I will not pick a fight with Hung In anymore. Jian Xian Yin was originally planning to get payback for hurting her soulmate so severely. I can't press level up immediately, I have to show that I am being enlightened after all, a single increase in the level of swordsmanship talent will not only improve my overall ability by 10%, but also improve level 5 sword intent, level 5 sword heart, and level 5 normal attack. My resultant power will probably double on it, or maybe it will increase even more. The time is almost ripe. Swordsmanship Talent Level 4 Upgraded to Swordsmanship Talent Level 5 Chao GE Marshal Uncle Lu broke through once again. We must be getting old. That child has broken through once again. I wonder how many moves from Hang Yin can he withstand now. He is merely a sword cultivator from Qing Zhou. Why are you so delighted? What do you mean by merely a sword cultivator from Qing Zhou? That is our Chun Chiu Mountain son-in-law. A son-in-law is half a son, do you understand? Good gracious. Sword heart, sword intent. Ha ha ha. I've saved up so many experience points all to be used today. Come come come, both of you will get an upgrade too. 
Sword Heart level for the upgrade to the next level requires 16 million EXP confirm upgrade. Sword Intent level for the upgrade to the next level requires 16 million EXP confirm upgrade. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. 16 million. And both of them have that same price. You might as well rob it off me. Both of you, look at sword techniques, it only requires this much. Sword technique. I guess I will wait till I get a 50% discount voucher or upgrade points before I level up sword intent and sword heart. I will level up my sword techniques first. Level 5 slowed sound, level 5 normal attack. Next, let me see if upgrading the sec to rank 6 will give me some good stuff. Reward 1, EXP 5 million, reward 2, Swordsmanship Upgrade Point X1, Reward 3, Random Special Item, it's here, it's here. This is the good stuff I want. Sec Mission The Fourth Phase MO Sec's main mission expand the MO Sect. 1. MO Sect should contain 100 members at level 20 and above. 2. MO Sect should attain reputation value of 15,000 completed, current reputation value 27808. 3. MO Sect should have 2 great cultivators at rank 5 and above, or 5 cultivators at the max of rank 4. Current Progress January 2nd. Reward 1. EXP 5 million. Reward 2. Swordsmanship Upgrade Voucher X1. Reward 3. Random Special Item. In this chosen one's hands, random special item is equivalent to an orange reward. It is fortunate there is a guaranteed orange reward, and these few millions of EXP is really just a nice bonus. In that case, let's see how hard it is to get promoted to a rank 6 sect. MO sect should contain 100 members at level 20 and above. 100 members at level 20 and above. It's time for the players to make an effort and stop slacking around. I've got to find a way to whip them into shape. The second condition MO sec should attain a reputation value of 15,000. I'm already close to 30,000, so this is completed. MO sec attains two great cultivators at rank 5 and above, or five cultivators at the max of rank 4. Current progress 12 hmm. Why is there a completed one at the end of this line? This one. Damn, that little Lizzie. She is really powerful. Besides, I have two more soul jades at hand, and their sizes aren't small. I wonder how many levels can Hating break through. Anyways, it should be no problem clearing the third condition. Hey hey, if it really comes to it, I will simply level up a few more times. Being a rank 5 expert isn't bad after all. Now, which kid broke through the third rank? Sick members, rank 3 and above, Lu Dong Li, Lu Chao Ge, Hei Ting, M.O. Dong Fong. H.M.? It's M.O. Dong Fong and not Luo Bing? This little monkey, did he have a stroke of luck? I'm suddenly a little excited to see what surprises these kids will bring when I return to the mountain. Not one in my great M.O. sect is a pushover. If what is little Lizzy hiding? She ranked up even faster than the world's main characters. There's definitely more to this. I really want to pinch her face and interrogate her viciously. All right, my moment of enlightenment is over. If I don't wake up, these two protecting me would think that I've got a stroke. Chow G.E., did you have a sudden enlightenment? Not quite. I was just gifted with rewards for the sex upgrade. It's starting, it's starting again. This is clearly a sudden enlightenment. This is sudden enlightenment. You're lying. This is not good, not good at all. I am the saint's disciple. I have to ask my master for harsher training. I can't fall too much behind Marshal Uncle Lou. I will cultivate as if my life depends on it. I will go to the hell of swords. The current Lu Chao GE doesn't realize that he has already become. Lu protagonist motivator Chao GE. Marshal Aunt Jiang, Marshal Uncle Lu, I have some urgent business so I will take my leave. What urgent business does she have? This urgency, maybe that has happened. But what? Shut up. Fine, 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 I will stop messing around. A few days later. These few days pass by so quickly, 
but why are they not mentioned in detail? Because these few days are filled with boring love scenes, but I know that all of you aren't interested in that, so I will not elaborate further. This atmosphere and this view really makes one feel like reciting a poem. This heavy snow, white like goose feathers, are like goose feathers that. Did another senior brother or sister come to visit? These few days, there were so many that visited for an idle chat, I don't remember their faces anymore. Good morning, sect leader Lou. A bitch is not welcome. What? Nothing, I was reciting a poem just now. Brother Zhao, why don't you come in and take a seat? Thank you for your hospitality. Sect leader Lu, as the saying goes amidst blows, friendship grows, since both of us fought before, you are now my brother. I will call you junior brother Lu, how does that sound? I don't deserve this honor, brother Zhao, please continue to call me sect leader Lu. Ugh. You damn shit, not even willing to give me respect despite me meeting you face to face. I heard you called me a bitch just now. You better not let me find a chance. Once I get a chance to catch you, I will rip the skin off your back. That's fine. I came here today because I heard that when sect leader Lu first came to Beizhou, you killed a moonlight ice wolf king in the icy fields, eliminating a big threat from Beizhou. This monster slaying story is circulating rapidly in Beizhou, and I am very curious about the details. I kindly ask sect leader Lu for your recount of the event. Of course, of course, but this is a long story, it will take some time. Of course, of course, take your time, I'm not urgent. You Beijo traitor. I killed your daddy monster and you came here to collect information, what a shameless asshole. Once I managed to grab hold of your treacherous tail, punching you senseless would be the least of what I would do. As for the details on how I killed the beast, don't even think about hearing it. Since Brother Zhao wants to know so badly, I will recount in great detail. Good, good, good. That day, I was going past the area when I saw a monster causing trouble. Thus, I lifted my sword and a swing, I killed it. And then? And then? And then, the end. That's all? But that's not an ordinary Moonlight Ice Wolf King, though. Sect Leader Lu, there is no need to keep me in suspense. There is nothing more to it. I just happened to be in that area and killed it at my convenience. There is nothing more to it. I just happened to be in that area and killed it at my convenience. Since Sect Leader Lu is unwilling to divulge the details, this one will no longer impose myself on you. Now that I think of it, Sect Leader Lu is indeed extraordinary. There is no way a mere moonlight ice wolf king would be a match for you. In that case, please do see yourself out. Jerk. You absolute jerk. That moonlight ice wolf king was supposed to be my lucky break. That day, I made an agreement with someone. Once the moonlight ice wolf king was resurrected, he would be sent to my blood formation and be forced under my control. I am no longer able to break through the sixth rank, but the moonlight ice wolf king is at least a seventh rank mythical beast. If I had controlled it, there is nowhere I couldn't go, and no one I need to lower my head to. I am clearly the senior brother. But there are just some people, it's fine if they only arrived later than me, but they also looked at me as if they were looking at an insignificant blade of grass. This kind of Chun Kiwi Mountain, what's the point of staying any longer? But on that day, I waited for one day and one night, and the Moonlight Ice Wolf King was nowhere in sight. Moreover, I quickly got wind of a miraculous story where Lu Chao Ge slew a wolf under the moonlight. I despise it. Every single one of you is looking down on me. I will make all of you pay sooner or later. Who does Senior Zhao hate? Ah, uh, this, you must have heard wrongly. I said I love Chun Chiu Mountain, not despise it. Please go ahead and cultivate, don't let me disturb you. Indeed, Senior Zhao is an elegant and refined gentleman. There is no way he despises anyone. He is such a benevolent elder. Yan Chao Ji, who are you talking to? Zhao Ji Qi. Brother Zhao came just now for a few words. The outfit Xian Yin is wearing today is so suitable for me to marry her and bring her home as my wife. Oh right, 
I am a little curious, which desire did Brother Zhao Zhiqi amplify using Chen Qiu Mountain martial arts? Chen Qiu Mountain's disciples are unaware of each other's amplified desire, and I rarely observe those next to me as well, so I'm not very sure about him. I've guessed that's what you'd say. I guess that he amplified his jealousy. Why did you say that? It's a guess, but I am 99% confident I'm right. A person with a heavy heart of jealousy was defeated on the stage by me in front of an audience. Why would he lower his head and visit me for information regarding the Moonlight Ice Wolf King? There is only one reason to explain that. He came for the Soul Jade. It seems that the journey returning home from Chen Chiu Mountain will be quite exciting. If he comes to seek his own death, I don't mind receiving some experience points and increasing my contribution to the Beijou main plot mission. Since you are already awake, I will head to the kitchen to give you a bowl of soup. Breakfast is already prepared. I was waiting for you to wake up. Chow Ji, Marshall Uncle Lu made soup. I want a bowl. I want a huge bowl. The dishes Marshall Uncle Lu made are so delicious. If only I could eat them for the rest of my life, that would be wonderful. He he he. With the way she is eating, is she not scared of gaining weight? Cultivators have their own unique ways to reduce weight. So you, I only love to drink alcohol. Alcohol won't make a person fat. I'm finally full, Marshall Uncle Lou. I'm here today. Burp because, burp. Many thanks, Marshall Aunt Jiang. I'm here today on my master's orders. She wants to leave home for a trip and is wondering if Marshall Uncle Lou wishes to accompany her. Is your Marshall Aunt Jiang allowed to follow too? Master told me specifically that she only wants you to accompany her. The saintess wants me to follow her? Perhaps it's a lucky opportunity for you. All right, let's not delay any further. I will leave right now. Bringing me out alone to who knows where, the saintess is giving me the same feeling as asking a bar girl out for a night. Chun Chiu Mountain Bag Mountain Saintess Place of Residence, the residence of an expert is indeed protected by a protection array, just like mine. Sect Leader Lu, please come over, Master made some improvements to the protection array, it is able to recognize me directly. As expected of the saint, to be able to implement fingerprint recognition on a protection array. I have to make the same improvement to Dan Ching Mountain's protection array in the future. It is troublesome, after all, to carry an access plate whenever we want to leave the sect. If we have to cross through multiple protection arrays, we would have to carry a waste full of access plates. How on aesthetic. Master, I have brought sect leader Lu. Please come out quickly. Not home? Here I am. Is this the legendary saint's resonance of heaven and earth? Qian Qian, what took you so long? I had a little soup at sect leader Lu's place. You really should manage your gluttony. I know master. Eh? Sect leader Lu. This, heavenly beauty. At your service. I heard that the saintess is a beauty freak. To think that even in our second meeting, she is still frozen by my appearance. Am I too handsome? Or is she too obsessed with beauty? She won't lust after my body, would she? You must be curious about where I'm going to bring you, are you? Yes, I'm quite curious. I'm bringing you to a place beyond the mountains, a place in the extreme north, a place in the Endless Sea. The Endless Sea? The Endless Sea is located in the northernmost border of the Beijing continent, but in actual fact it surrounds the four major continents. According to legends, the sea is boundless. In the last century, there were fools who fervently ingurgitated recovery potions as they flew frantically for months over the endless sea, but they never managed to find an end. Both of you close your eyes. I'm going to? I thought that master wanted to enjoy a private date with sect master Lu. I might have thought too much. You can open your eyes now. Ah. Master, you've already teleported us? What you see below is the Eye of Chaos in the Endless Sea. Eye of Chaos? 
the same eye of chaos that started the great demonic beast calamity of ancient times? Where is it? Why can't I see it? The eye of chaos is located in the deepest trench of the endless sea. You can't see it with your naked eye. Use your abilities of perception to investigate. Let's see what the both of you can sense. Yes. All right. I can't do it, master. I tried three times, but it's just too deep. I'm not able to see the end. H.M. Marshal Uncle Lou, could you be able to see to the end? As expected of Marshal Uncle Lou. To the end, this is that man's determination. As expected, is this the limit of a fourth rank? Wait. There is the water everywhere. Isn't this a stage set for me? Power of Heaven and Earth Water Marshal Uncle Lou is using his power of water to see to the end. Not bad. Ah, I got one up by Marshal Uncle Lou once again. And in front of my master too. I might as well dump my head into the water and drown to death. Ah, it's so easy. After using the power of water, peering into the depths has become so much smoother. As expected, it was incredibly effective. Harmony of heaven and earth, this is strange. After using the power of water, this land of ancient calamity has suddenly become, suddenly become. So soothing. Furthermore, there is also another intriguing feeling. I feel like I'm the god of the endless sea. Everything is in the palm of my hands. As expected, no matter how many times I look at him, this beauty is unmatched. Boo-hoo-hoo, -hoo, I'm trash. I ain't see it. Ah, uh, you saw the Eye of Chaos? Being able to peer halfway into the depths is already an incredible feat, but he far exceeded my expectations. Yes. Marshal Uncle Lou, what does the Eye of Chaos look like? It's hard to describe. It's better if you see it yourself in the future. Fine, once I have the ability, I will see it myself, fine, once I have the ability, I will see it myself, fine, once I have the ability, I will see it myself. This, this, is really indescribable. Lu Chao Ge is here. What do you feel? Hatred, endless boundless hatred. A hatred that arises from within myself, and even I don't know the cause. Hatred. Did you rely on the power of water to see it? Your power of heaven and earth is different from everyone else. Yes. Good. In that case, sect leader Lu, if you manage to break through to the seventh rank one day, come to look for me in Chun Chiu Mountain. I have something to give you. H.M.? Ah. This. This. The saint is sound so serious, but I can't see her expression right now. Could it be that she is giving me a treasure? This, this, this. Master, why did your face suddenly turn red? Could it be that you, you want to give that? Master, please wake up. He is Marshal Aunt John's man. This is bad. I have to stop this from happening. This is my responsibility. I will convince Master when we get back. You are facing the unknown land. Eye of Chaos, as per the system's judgment, this act far exceeds the pace of the main plot. Rewards are currently processing. Ching Zhou main plot mission King Hades sword mission progress has advanced 3%. Bei Zhou main plot mission Nirvana of evil spirits mission progress has advanced 3%. Lu Zhou main plot mission Heavenly Demons orb mission progress has advanced 3%. Nanjo main plot mission fiery apocalypse mission progress has advanced 3%. What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Calculations complete. The system has increased your contribution level. The main plot missions of the four great continents have all advanced by 3%. The main plot missions of the four great continents have all advanced 3% because of me. In total, that is 12%. Doesn't this mean that when the rewards are handed out, I will benefit the most? All I did was just glance at it, that's all. Could it be? 
that this eye of chaos is a cheek that will bring me, Lu Chao Ge, to greatness? I can't maintain this perception state any longer. Looks like it's time to head back. This thing is alive? If you stare into the abyss, the abyss stares back at you. I didn't sense wrongly. Sect leader Lu, your face is rather pale. Did you feel something else? Saintus, is the Eye of Chaos a living being? Ancient world of Tian Xian. In the ancient times, the world of cultivation was at its peak, but it was also at this time that the ancient calamity Eye of Chaos emerged. Countless numbers of powerful demonic beasts poured from within, wreaking havoc on the entire Tian Xian. In this catastrophe littered with corpses, a monster capable of rivaling the Emperor Qin was born. He was Hades. And at that time, the strongest person in the cultivation world, the founder of the special rank great sect, who was revered the number one supreme, Emperor Qin. The battle lasted for days and nights. In the end, Tian Yi Dao was destroyed, and King Hades disappeared, while Emperor Qing was nowhere to be found. Ever since that day, the cultivation world never recovered, and there was no longer a being like Emperor Qing. In the past, Qing Zhou's first sword sovereign stepped into the ninth rank and became the first person in the world to do so. But ever since he has fallen, there has been no one who has reached the ninth rank. This is the past of the Eye of Chaos. You asked if it's alive. I cannot give you a definite answer. But I have the same feeling as you do. Since it is not able to move, why not destroy it? Do you have the courage to oppose it? You do not need to answer. Even if it's us four powerhouses, we do not have the courage. We won't be able to damage it. No, we don't even dare to damage it. If we cause any unexpected changes, there is no one like Emperor Qing left in this world. Indeed, there is more than it meets the eye. Otherwise, there is no need to reward me so much for just looking at the eye. The world of Tian Xian is now my home, and I have my family, my friends, and my master here. If you ever think about destroying them, I will come and seal up your eye hole. It's time to return, both of you close your eyes. Eh, we are returning so soon? It wasn't quick. This trip must have been a test for my power of water. The saint said that she will give me a gift once I reach seventh rank. This is the result of my test. What could it be? If there is nothing else, I will take my leave. Even though I'm curious, I can't ask her straight away. It's better if I go back. Eh, marital Uncle Lou is returning so soon? Why does it feel like nothing has happened? Different people really have such polarizing perspectives. All Pei Qian Qian did on this trip was to be useless and stare at the sea. Wait, I heard that junior brother Ji Chang Kong once talk you with the sword? That's right. What does the saint mean by this? Is she going to teach me something with the spear? Then does sect leader Lu have any interest in unity of heaven and humanity? Of course, I've heard a little about it before, but if I were to experience it by myself, it would be very useful. Yes. If I'm right, the saintess is going to give me a free lesson on unity of heaven and humanity. This will definitely be regarded as effective guidance. Then please come to the back mountain tomorrow, sect leader Lu. Yes, thank you very much, saint. Tomorrow? Why can't it be today? With this kind of delayed suspense, if this was a web novel about an overpowered MC, all the readers would have ran away already. As expected, after the main plot mission of the four great continents was advanced by a huge amount, the forum exploded. To think there's someone that guessed that I'm the reason behind it, you really are a smart person. But to those who thought that I was too busy fighting for her hand in marriage and couldn't do the main plot missions, all of you are too narrow-minded. This venerable one can advance the main plot missions no matter where I am, all right? Master, when you brought me to the Endless Sea today, was it really just to observe the Eye of Chaos? I was bringing sect leader Lu to observe the Eye of Chaos, but you happened to be in the way. I happened to be in the way, I happened to be in the way, 
I happen to be in the way. Wait, something's fishy. Why did you bring Marshal Uncle Lou to observe the Eye of Chaos? Master, did you have a hidden agenda in mind? Knowing your personality, you would definitely not bring Marshal Uncle Lou to observe the Eye of Chaos at a whim. Master, please tell me the truth. Your master wanted to verify some speculations. As to what these speculations are, I can't tell you yet. Humph, if you don't want to tell me, then don't. Forgive your master. All right, master. Besides, are you going to show the unity of heaven and humanity to Marshal Uncle Lou tomorrow? Unity of heaven and humanity is our strongest martial path. Even within the inner circles of Chun Chiu Mountain, it is a closely held secret. The one that is going to show unity of heaven and humanity is not me, but you. Ah, uh, me? Am I even worthy? Have I stepped into the realm of the unity of heaven and humanity? Why don't I know about it? Tomorrow, I will guide you and let you sense this realm. Oh, so it is like that. Thank God, I do not need to demonstrate. If I were the one demonstrating to him and I failed, Marshal Uncle Lou's impression of me would definitely fall like crazy. Come, let's enter the house. Wait, Master, I am still unclear about one thing. Master, you told Marshal Uncle Lou that once he reached the seventh rank, you would give him a gift. It's not. It couldn't be. That, could it? Ah, uh, ah, uh. How could you just admit that so calmly, that is, that is? He is indeed the one your master chose. Chose, if there is someone in the world worthy of master, it would be Marshal Uncle Lou. They really are compatible, but... But, but... Marshal Uncle Lou and Marshal Aunt Jiang are lovers. Oh, that's right. How could I forget? Master has finally woken up from her daydream. Phew. Looks like it's time for me to find a suitable opportunity to have a little negotiation with junior sister Jiang. Master, please wake up. Can this type of stuff even be negotiated? Pei Qian Qian didn't manage to get a wink of sleep that night. Damn it. Just thinking about that thing keeps me awake. Ah, this relationship is so complicated. How can it be like this? But apart from Marshal Uncle Lu, who else in the world is worthy of master? At least they are well suited for each other. What about me? Who will I be compatible with in the future? Ah, uh, I'm not going to think about it anymore. Calm your heart, Pei Qian Qian. Calm your heart. You're awake? Good timing. Breakfast is ready. It smells so good. Xian Yin, I will probably return to my sect after a few days. Will you come with me, or will you stay in Chun Chiu Mountain for a while? I will stay here for a while, I have some unfinished business left in the sect, and some other troublesome errands to run. Once you've left, I plan to read Chun Chiu again. When I'm done with everything, I will come find you in M.O. Sect. Chun Chiu? In my past life, I've studied this legendary book before. It is a bit similar to the sword marks in the sword sect. As long as you analyze it, you would definitely trigger a system reward. By logic, with Xian Yin at level 60, she should have already studied the book multiple times. Chun Chiu is a wordless book left behind by the founder of Chun Chiu Mountain. Every direct disciple in Chun Chiu Mountain has three chances in their lives to study and understand Chun Chiu. I have one more chance left. That's fine. Since you have important things to do, you don't have to come back to the sect with me. However, I did hear some rumors about you. According to the rumors, the sect leader and some of the elders are discussing whether they should break tradition and allow you to read Chun Chiu once. Will they agree to it? An outsider like me is able to read Chun Chiu Mountain's precious heirloom for free? You've helped Bei Zhou eliminate a Moonlight Ice Wolf King, and the tests you did were... So that's the case. Who suggested it? It seems like Chun Chiu Mountain has accepted me as their son-in-law. It should be the benevolent elder that suggested it, right? The sect leader. That guy has always been like that. Every time you finish washing, you always seem to play for a while. Every man will always be a young boy at heart who doesn't like superpowers. 
Xian Yin, I will be heading to the back mountains now. You're going again? This time, the saint is demonstrating the realm of unity of heaven and humanity. This is a huge opportunity. Fly a little faster, don't let the saint wait for too long and miss this opportunity. Marshal Uncle Lu. This girl, where has her enthusiasm gone? It feels like there is something weighing on her chest. Could she be facing puberty anxiety? We greet the saint. What's going on? Am I mistaken? Why do they look so harmonious in the same frame together? Both of you, follow me. Yes. Come up here. Give me your hand. Her hand is so soft and not icy at all, there is a comfortable warmth to it. Close your eyes and calm your heart. So shaky. It feels like I'm sitting on a drop tower. This, this. This world is alive. Is this the realm of unity of heaven and humanity? You are now experiencing unity of heaven and humanity imitation. So this is just an imitated realm. Lightning, so this is Pei Qian Qian's emulated realm of unity of heaven and humanity. So this is Chun Chiu Mountain's greatest secret. To be able to experience it once made this trip to Chun Chiu Mountain so much more worthwhile. With this level of guidance, the system will certainly judge it as effective guidance. You've obtained effective guidance from the saint. The system is converting it to a reward. It's coming. I wonder what kind of rewards I can choose this time. There are no choices? This time, I brought both of you here because I want to see how Chao Ge's comprehension compare with Qian Qian's. A lightning phenomenon, this is Qian Qian's power of heaven and earth, she has made some breakthroughs. This is Qian Qian's third time being brought into an imitated realm, right? Yes, how are you free enough to come and watch this? That is not important. I just didn't expect you to spare no effort in breaking the convention to guide Lu Chao Ge. This will massively drain your spiritual energy. Even if it's you, you will be tired in the end. I'm happy to do so. You. But it's obvious that this person will waste your good intentions. Look at the sky. There is only lightning and thunder. This shows that despite Lu Chao Ge experiencing unity of heaven and humanity, his power of heaven and earth has made no advancements at all. HM? The snow stopped. Chun Chiu Mountain is located in Beizhou and only experiences summer and winter. Summertime brings extreme heat while winter heralds in a blizzard. Now that the snow has stopped, it looks like we won't just be seeing lightning anymore. Impossible. With the current rank of that guy, how could his comprehension be so great? Rain, come. Rain. It's raining. How could it be raining? It never rains in Chun Chiu Mountain during winter. Have the heavens changed their mind? Such a heavy rain. Such a heavy rain, it rarely rains in Chun Chiu Mountain. Could this be related to Chao Ge? This kid hasn't woken up yet. Besides, the power of heaven and earth within him shows no signs of fluctuation. Qian Qian's power of lightning was drawn out while experiencing the imitated realm of unity of heaven and humanity, which triggered the lightning phenomenon. But he, his body shows no fluctuations in his power of heaven and earth. This is no longer the doing of the power of heaven and earth. It is resonance of heaven and earth. Only when you first step into the fifth rank will you trigger a minute instance of resonance of heaven and earth. But this guy isn't even in the fifth rank yet. Furthermore, with this quantity of rain, it has already far exceeded the minute territory. This kind of resonance of heaven and earth, even I wouldn't be able to achieve it. It's normal to be unable to do so, because you do not have an attribute. You can't do it either. Yes, that's why I invited him to experience the imitated realm of unity of heaven and humanity. He is special. 
He is indeed special and very peculiar. If he wakes up, he won't be able to achieve this level of resonance of heaven and earth. After all, this isn't even resonance of heaven and earth. This is commanding heaven and earth with absolute order. With one word, he is capable of flipping the entire world upside down. If one day he is able to reach this realm with full consciousness, this world might see the pinnacle of cultivation once again. Even since I joined Chun Chiu Mountain, I have never seen such heavy rain. This rain is related to Lu Chao Ge, guaranteed. He has the water attribute. These groups of people are players. Could he have broken through again? Could it be this ridiculous? If you think that's real, then the crazy mother would open the door for craziness and let craziness into the house. To be able to use the innate power of water to draw out such a massive scale of rain at only fourth rank is simply unheard of. This man cannot live. I have to do something. If I wait for him to mature, he will threaten what we have planned sooner or later. One jaw stick worth of time after. The experience this time in the imitated realm has benefited me greatly. Hey, finally I would be able to close the gap between me and Marshal Uncle Lou. If my luck is good, there might even be a chance to overtake him. Eh, why is there such heavy rain? Master, sect leader, why is it raining in Chun Chiu Mountain in this season? It is because of the person beside you. Marshal Uncle Lou is also able to draw out the power of water in his subconscious state. Eh, the power of water on Marshal Uncle Lu is not moving at all. Qian Qian, you should take this opportunity to have a proper feel of it. Learn from your Marshal Uncle Lu. I've felt it a lot of times already. This massive rain has completely dampened my heart. The gap between Marshal Uncle Lu and I is getting wider and wider. Water, the surroundings, have so much water. Heaven and earth have become water and humans are also water too. With just a thought, the water will rise up in waves. Wait a second, those are the water in a person's body, and in front of me are the saint and Qian Qian. Can I even touch that water? Ten breaths before, regarding the formation of heavy rain in Chun Chiu Mountain, the actual reason for that is due to the system reward. Heaven and Earth Attachment Plus One Attachment of heaven and earth this is the second time I've gotten this, the first time, it granted me the power to control water to a highly, precise, level. What will the second time be like? So much water, the earth and the sky, they are glistening. These waters are calling out to me. The second level of attachment of heaven and earth has allowed Lu Chao Ge to trigger an unprecedented heavy rain in Chun Chiu Mountain and almost touched the water within the saint. He is waking up. I'm leaving. Then you should leave faster. Who knows if he is going to open his eyes in the next second. I've discussed with the elders. We are planning to break the tradition and allow him to see Chun Chiu for once. Oh? They are really soft. Unity of heaven and humanity is truly marvelous. It has broadened my mind. My mind has been broadened as well. Marshal Uncle Lu, what exactly have you enlightened? How did it set off such a downpour? Chun Chiu Mountain in wintertime has never ever seen rain. What a mysterious smile, what exactly have you enlightened? I've enlightened nothing, all I did was to allocate my points, this kind of explanation, will you understand? It is absolute command. What? I'm unable to do it when I'm awake. I was only able to achieve it just now due to the saint's help. But my power of heaven and earth has grown much stronger. This rain, it should be over. The sect leader was here just now. Before he left, he mentioned that you are allowed one chance to study Chun Chiu in the coming days. When the time comes, a messenger will be sent to inform you. Please give the sect leader my thanks. In that case, I will take my leave first. What are you thinking about? No, nothing. 
In that case, return to your room to meditate on the enlightenment you gained just now. Shouldn't you stabilize it within yourself? Ah, yes, yes, yes. Master, I will be returning first to stabilize my realm. That saying just now, your master, was also stunned for a brief moment. Compared to your master, you have a long way to go. Your ability to regain composure is far too weak. What exactly am I thinking? He is Marshal Aunt John's lover. But, that was really mesmerizing. Attachment of heaven and earth, he commands with one word. Charm tin, he commands with one handsome face. The only difference being the former is a master of water, but the latter sets hearts ablaze. Xian Yin, I'm back. You've really caused an uproar this time, that downpour, it was you that summoned it, right? How was it? Was it amazing? It was amazing. You should meditate to stabilize your realm quickly. If not, the saint's guidance will go to waste. I don't need to meditate at all. Come, let me help you with your tasks. This way you would be able to find me in M.O. Sect much sooner. Chun Chiu Mountain's affairs are different from M.O. Sect. No matter. Even if it's grinding ink, I can still save you some time. In the next few days, Lu Chao Ge and Jiang Xian Yin passed the time making out shamelessly. Until Hung Yin came for a visit. Chao Ge, who is it? Come with me to study Chun Chiu. Fine. May I come too, sect leader? Yes. I have a feeling that if I don't come, these two will fight each other again. Chun Chiu, the past me had studied it twice. One time it rewarded me with 200,000 EXP, while the other time I was rewarded with a random attribute point. In conclusion, what you get from viewing Chun Chiu is all up to luck. I wonder what rewards I will get from viewing it in this life. Chun Chiu Mountain Bag Mountain Ancestral Masters Library Chao Ji Daoist Sect Leader Daoist Sister Jiang is here too. Everyone has been waiting for you. Are all these people here to watch the excitement? In the long lives of cultivators, watching the excitement is one of the ways to dispel boredom. That library is where Chun Chiu is kept. Once you enter it, you will know how to study it. That library is where the founding ancestor established the sect. The marvel of Chun Chiu will far exceed all the treasures you've seen thus far. You must cherish the opportunity. Don't worry, I will. Nice to meet you. Tiresome socialization, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Do all these important people from Chun Chiu Mountain have nothing to do at all? All they know is to watch out for excitement all day long. Thank goodness the saint isn't here, or else the entire Chun Chiu Mountain will really collapse. It has begun. Everyone, today is such a momentous day. To not make a bet will be such a shame. Let's bet on how many times Lu Chao Ge will break through. Setting up a private gambling, your fine will be 1,000 spiritual stones. Ah, remember to pay your fines to the law enforcement hall. I'll bet that he will break through his power of water. No problem, sect leader. I will definitely pay the fine. I bet that Lu Chao Ge will break through twice. I bet that Lu Chao Ge will break through once. Junior Sister Jiang, are you not betting? You are the one that understands him the most. I bet that he will break through thrice. Awesome. After breaking through three times, he would be one step away from becoming a great cultivator. This is Chun Chiu. It is the same as my previous life. The surroundings of Chun Chiu are bound by a tenfold protection array. After all, it is the most precious treasure of Chun Chiu Mountain. And this Chun Chiu is special in some ways. Firstly, it is a wordless grand book. Whatever you enlighten would be directly transmitted to your brain. Even if it is the founder of Chun Chiu Mountain, he won't be able to read the words within. Secondly, this is a book that can never be touched by someone beneath the ninth rank. Third, as this book cannot be touched, there is no way to turn the pages. To study it, it will turn its pages automatically, as to which page it lands on, and what I can learn from it, it's all up to chance. Do you want to analyze Chun Chiu? 
Analyze. So, this time, what will it give me? What's going on? Why is it just glowing and not flipping through the pages? Could it be that this thing can even recognize that I'm not from Chunchio Mountain? That's right, I remember now. I have to use divine consciousness to open the book. Just staring at it won't do anything. Since I will be using divine consciousness to study the book anyway, I will use the sword heart in tandem as well. I wonder what the effects will be. This feeling is different from my previous life. Is it because of the sword heart, there's even a feeling that it has been waiting for a long time. It has started flipping through its pages. Where will it stop? It's flipping nonstop? The, the heck. Take good care of the key Lu Chao GE. My name is on this 10,000 years old book that doesn't even have any words. There is someone from 10,000 years ago saying that I have a key and is telling me to take good care of it. In my past life, I was a Chun Chiu Mountain disciple, so I know all the strategies, events, and settings related to it like the back of my hand. Tian Xian World Closed Testing Forums, Chun Chiu Mountain was established later than the Sword Sect, but it has a history of more than a 10,000 years, and in the settings it was clearly stated that the treasure Chun Chiu is a wordless grand book. Even if it is the founder of Chun Chiu Mountain, he wouldn't be able to see a single word. In that case, where did the words come from? A prank by the book spirit? That's impossible. If it's really a prank, then that's way too ridiculous. And the most absurd part is, take good care of the key? What key? What does it do? Where is it? This is such a triple kill, I have absolutely no idea what key it's referring to. Besides, the system hasn't given out any rewards yet. I will see what I can analyze. As expected, I can't analyze anything at all. There is something wrong with this book, something very wrong. And the most important thing is, as there is no reaction from the system, there are no rewards. Did I read this chunchio for nothing? It's flying towards me. I can't even touch it, so why is it flying towards me? Unless... I can touch it. A book that is told by legends that it can only be held by a ninth rank expert. This book is now in my hands. Hmm? Saint? Why are you here? He is holding Chun Chiu. What? This is impossible. This is definitely impossible. Isn't Chun Chiu untouchable by anyone under the ninth rank? I don't believe it. Let me see. There is another situation whereby Chun Chiu can be picked up by someone. And that is Chun Chiu has found its new master. Our sex sacred treasure has acknowledged a new master? Ah, uh, I can't accept this kind of thing. The only thing we agreed on was to lend him the book, but now he is going to take the book away with him? If I'm able to touch it, I should also be able to flip the pages, right? It's opened. You have successfully comprehended a page of Chun Chiu. The system is converting it to rewards. You have earned 5 million EXP as a reward. The system. It's finally reacting. There's only 10 pages in this book. I wonder what other rewards are hidden within the pages. 10 chances. Let's see if I can get a gold legendary reward. Give me a random attribute upgrade point. Give me a swordsmanship upgrade. Give me sword intent. Give me a skill upgrade voucher. Give me, give me, give me. You have successfully comprehended one page of Chun Chiu, conversion to rewards in progress. You have earned 5 million EXP as rewards. You have successfully comprehended one page of Chun Chiu, conversion to rewards in progress. You have earned 5 million EXP as rewards. You have successfully comprehended one page of Chun Chiu, conversion to rewards in progress. You have earned 5 million EXP as rewards. It's all EXP points. I thought there would be something special, but it's all fixed rewards. Chun Chiu, you are a disappointment. Hey, it's changing once again. Is there something good? Is this thing really a book? 
What kind of book slaps you if you call it a disappointment? What kind of book lets you pick it up for one second and prevents you from doing so in the next? Let me try once more. What if I can pick it up and flip 10 more pages again? One page is 5 million. 10 pages is 50 million. If I can farm this here for free, I'm willing to call it the world's most powerful divine book. Unfortunately, the fate between Lu Chao Ji Yi and Chun Chiu ends here. Haze. Fine, I will leave. 5 million EXP is already a steal. It would be rude of me to ask for more. I'm really leaving. Once I step outside, I can't come back again. Those two lines of hints, I don't know what they mean. Haze, as for which key and why I should safe keep it, I really won't know anything if you don't tell me. As expected, this guy does have a soul. Eh, aren't you supposed to be wordless? Now not only do you have words, but there are pictures too. If you combine them together, aren't you a man -wa? He's out. He's out. Why are they all so enthusiastic? Everyone look, it's not in his hands. That's great. He didn't take it away. That is the book that founded our sect. If it were to be taken by someone, it would be the end of our sect. Could it be possible that he hid it in his storage ring? It could be under his clothes. Ah, what are you all talking about? Stop searching. Chun Chiu is still in the hut. It's not on him. That's a relief. If the saint says so, then it must be true. As long as it wasn't taken away, everything is all right. She seems to know something? Sect Leader Lu, did you touch Chun Chiu just now? Did he really touch it? Yes. And? And nothing. I only touched it once, and I can't touch it anymore after that. If all of you don't believe me, you can find someone who hasn't used up their quota to enter the hut with me. Everything would be clear by then. You might not know this sect leader Lu, but if two people go at once, the space will suffer a collapse. For the past 10,000 years, Chun Chiu Mountain expended large amounts of spiritual energy to restore this ancestral master library. That is astonishing. This book is even more ridiculous than the visual sword monument in Sword Sect. But it is fortunate that the Sword Sect has the Hell of Swords or it would have lost to Chun Chiu Mountain. Since we are unable to determine if Chun Chiu is in the library, I have a suggestion that not only does not require entering the hut, but also being able to reveal the truth. If Sect Leader Lu reveals his divine soul and allows us to investigate, everything can be proven. It looks like he wants to search my soul. The probing of the divine soul that he speaks of is akin to stripping one naked and exposing everything for the world to see. Furthermore, a soul that has been reaped to be revealed will be riddled with thousands of deep scars. This is no longer just bearing yourself for everyone to see, but to be played and humiliated in all totality. Absolutely not. Probing the divine soul will hurt Chao Ge. This kind of thing is absolutely not acceptable. This kind of thing depends on both of their attitudes. There is no need. Sect Leader Lu is speaking the truth. He only touched Chun Chiu. That's all. Furthermore, this kind of proposal, I do not wish to hear any more in the future. I was just joking, just joking. But why did this happen? In the past 10,000 years, why is he the only one able to touch Chun Chiu? As no one has been able to do so, it has become an absolute fact. But what has been written in history can always be rewritten. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but I'm different from the rest of you. I have an answer in my heart. There is no need to debate any further. Since the saint already has an answer, everybody can leave. But the bet just now, the victor hasn't been decided yet. What this person amplified was her gambling addiction. A bet. Bet? Everyone started betting on how many times you would break through. Even the sect leader? I placed a bet on you breaking through your power of water. Did you make a bet? I made a casual bet that you would break through three times to not rain on the parade. I only made the bet to fuel the excitement, that's all. But there were no changes in the aura on your body. It is obvious that you did not break through at all. 
It looks like those betting on sect leader Lu not gaining any enlightenment have won this gamble. Please hold, this gamble is not over yet. You've won this gamble. Spiritual wind art activated. Fourth rank, eighth heavenly layer, fourth rank, ninth heavenly layer, fifth rank, fifth rank, great completion. In the span of a breath, he broke through three levels. This gamble was won by my lover Exa and Yen. To all the elders present, if you agree to bet, you must agree to lose. How is it? Are you happy? I'm happy. Today's events have really widened my horizons. To be able to reach fifth rank great completion after breaking through three times in the span of a breath. Lu Chao Ge indeed lives up to his reputation. Lu Chao Ge. Since everyone has left, we should also, please wait, I have something to ask sect leader Lu. What a coincidence, I have something to ask the saint as well. Saint, do you mind telling me where did the founder of Chun Chiu Mountain found the Chun Chiu, or from whom did this book come from? This is top secret. Even I, who was part of the upper management of Chun Chiu Mountain, have no idea. The saint probably won't answer this, will she? It was found in one of the ruins of Tian Yi Dao. Tian Yi Dao. As expected, Tian Yi Dao pops up again. The special rank supreme sect of ancient times. The sword sect was also originated from it. Since it belonged to Tian Yi Dao, that cyan lotus flower. Take good care of the key Lu Chao Ge, that lotus flower was left by the strongest cultivator of ancient times, the Qing Emperor. Those lines of text, were they also left by the Qing Emperor? Chun Chiu came from the ruins of Tian Yi Dao. I believe that sect leader Lu can guess the rest. There is no need to be surprised. The current us is nothing but the remnants of a world where cultivation was at its peak. Thank you, Saint, for the information. What was it that you wanted to ask me? There is nothing. Both of you may return. Heh, this is strange. One moment she had something she wanted to ask me, but the next she said there was nothing. What is she thinking? Could it be that Xian Yin was present and it wasn't a good time to ask? So be it, when the appropriate time comes, she will ask me on her own. Lu Chao Ge, you have widened my eyes to new possibilities once again today. To think that you are the first person in 10,000 years to touch Chun Chiu. The Endless Sea, the Eye of Chaos. I hope that you can reach the seventh rank as soon as possible. Unity of Heaven and Humanity Activate, I have forgotten how long it's been since I last set foot here. Expanding the realm of unity of heaven and humanity is the only way to freely enter this place. After all, the technique of unity of heaven and earth comes from you. I am really curious, you are merely a single book from the past Tian Yi Dao, yet you have such an intense power. Just how powerful was Tian Yi Dao? Why, ignoring me? Long time no see. Spirit of Chun Chiu. So you chose him? Then why? Why did you let him touch you? It's just like the previous time, there is no way to communicate with it. It's alright if you don't say it, because I chose him. In this current moment, Lu Chao Ge is circulating dysmenorrhea, but this technique is no longer able to cause him to vomit blood. He is trying to pretend like he is digesting what he has learned today like a normal cultivator from Tian Qian. But there was no need at all. Chao Ge's complexion is not looking well, a beautiful audience that doesn't know the truth. Chao Ge, your complexion doesn't seem to look so good. Do you want to rest for a moment? I'm fine. Enlightenment from Chun Chiu and breaking through three levels might have put a toll on me. It seems that the effectiveness of circulating the technique was as small as a mosquito leg, but I can't tell this to Xi and Yan, might as well go with the flow. Take a rest for a moment? Sure. I want to sleep like this. Eh? You don't agree? As long as you are happy. If those two lines are really from the hands of the Emperor Qing, then what key does he want me to safe keep? Maybe it is the wooden plate? 
But the world's protagonists also owned a wooden plate. There is not only one, so that definitely couldn't be it. That's right, our demented treasure spirit would definitely know something. It looks like it's time to return to the sect. Even if I exhaust my brain, I still won't be able to come up with anything. Lu Chao Ge, have you thought it through? Are you really rushing back to your sect and not staying for a few more days? This venerable one wishes to spar with you a few more times. You even ruined Marshal Uncle Lu's clothes the last time, haven't you had enough? Does the sect leader have an obsession with beating up his love rival? Yes, I came today to bid you goodbye. I had achieved some enlightenment, and the affairs in my sect must have been piling up. It's best if I return as soon as I can. In that case, why don't you follow me to study Chun Chiyo, and we go back together? It's not as if our time together is limited. We have our whole future ahead of us. After you are done, I will be with you every single moment. All right. Humph. Hurry up and go if you are leaving. What an eyesore. So the stern and dignified sect leader does throw a hissy fit sometimes. But even Marshal Aunt Jiang is not following Marshal Uncle Lu down the mountain. I'm not qualified to suggest going down together. Hayes, I, I really want to follow Marshal Uncle Lu down the mountain. Sect leader Lu, please remember our promise. Promise? Junior Sister Jiang, I will tell you about it when the time comes. In the future, I have something to discuss with you. Master, please. How could you just say this type of thing out loud in front of everyone? What kind of stuff needs to be discussed with me? I will remember it well. Even though I don't know why the saint wants me to rise to the seventh rank, I am 90% sure it is something good. Could it be a huge opportunity waiting for me? Take good care of the key. Lu Chao Ge, but what is important right now is to get to the bottom of those two lines of words. And there is another reason why I can't let Xian Yin follow me. Because, if she is by my side, there are many things I can't do easily, such as the completing my level 50 rank up mission. Chao Ge, with me here, those demonic beasts won't harm a single hair on you. If this happened, then my rank-up mission would never be completed. I have to farm the monsters by myself. If not, the system will rate it with a very low score. Besides, once I'm done with my level 50 rank-up mission, I will become a bona fide great cultivator. In my current state, even if the mood is set, there is a 99.9999% chance of not being able to break through her defenses. But once I break through, I will be able to penetrate to the end with a single thrust, like splitting a bamboo. Why is your face red? Ahem, ahem, it could be some leftover effects from Chun Chiyo's enlightenment. Well then everyone, till we meet again. Chowga, Lu Chowga. Goodbye. Go ahead and leave, your moment of death is approaching. The fifth rank. I'm going to break into the fifth rank. Sword Domain Title Status Dominance They will all increase like never before. Because, after the fifth rank, I will be recognized in the Tianxian world as the great cultivator. Father, mother, our M.O. sect will finally have a great cultivator. Three, M.O. sect should have two great cultivators at rank five and above, or five cultivators at the max of rank four. Current progress, one half, take a look at that. Ah, right, my sister is already at the fifth rank. As her older brother, how could I always be crushed by my younger sister? Where in the world will you find an older brother that is always inferior to his younger sister? H.M.? Why is there an unread notice? The Shrine of the Purple Moon Cult. This is it. This notice will be given to players after level 50, and everyone will gather in parties to head over. This is the location of the Purple Moon Cult's gathering. Doesn't this mean that once I complete my rank-up mission, I will be able to go? After all, my party consists of only me. I'm not going overboard, am I? Rank-up mission. Yellow, blue, purple, orange, you have earned the right to be promoted. Please select your mission level. Sorry, but I only see one choice. Let me see, 
Just what the highest difficulty has to offer. Orange. Rank up mission, launch a counterattack and kill the 5th rank demonic cultivator Chong Hui lying in ambush along the way. Kill? This person named Chong Hui is trying to assassinate me? Chong Hui, the name sounds familiar, but why can't I recall the person? Whatever, since it is a demonic cultivator, I will just have to kill him. Grandpa, Grandma, I'm back. I collected a huge bundle of firewood again. Our granddaughter is so capable. More capable than you, old man. Eh? Someone's there. Are you passing by? Do you want to warm up a bit in the house? Yes. You don't look like you are from around here. Bejo's weather is harsh. You have to be more careful. Okay. Grandma, today, I heard a legend about an immortal today. There is someone who came to Beijou from Qingzhou. He is very famous. His name is Lu Chao Ji Yi. They say that Lu Chao Ji Yi is not only highly profound in cultivation, but he is also incredibly good looking. The legends say that one glance at Lu Chao Ji Yi will ensnare your heart so much that you will not wish to marry anyone else. You are not allowed to see him then because grandma wants to see you married. He is an immortal. Where would I find the opportunity to meet him? You will have the opportunity. Demonic Beast Armored Silver Ant Mon, Monster R, Run You are not going anywhere. I will kill Lu Chao Ge right in front of your very eyes. When the time comes, I will blend your bloody flesh with his and offer it to my junior brother Chong Yin. At the other side, junior sister, I will be breaking through in seclusion. The battle on Chun Chiu stage with sect leader Lu has enlightened me. Senior brother Zhao will break through, that's really great. In that case, I will not bother senior brother Zhao any longer, I will take my leave. All right. He he. Seclusion? Do you think I'm in the mood for cultivating in seclusion right now? I'm going to kill that fella. I am in the sixth rank. If I used all my strength. One move. All I need to kill him is just one move. Ah. It's back again. This wound on my divine soul from your slash, I will repay it a hundred thousand fold. I remember now. My rank up mission when I broke through the fourth rank was to kill the demonic cultivator named Chong Yin. This Chong Hui must be related to him. Then, are they father and son? Or are they brothers? Or perhaps they are from the same family? Is the system trying to make me eradicate their entire family? But that's not important. If he is a demonic cultivator, then he deserves to die. Half a day more and I will reach the border between Beizhou and Qingzhou. Even though you are planning to ambush me, I now know your location. Now, as for who the hunter is and who the prey is, that remains to be seen. He's here. He's finally here. I have been waiting for a long time. Lu Chao Ji. Lu Chao Ga, please save us. Before Chong Yin died, he sent an image back, but I could not see Lu Chao Ji's face. But everywhere in Qing Zhou and Bei Zhou is preaching this phrase, it seems like he is incredibly good looking. No matter how handsome you are, when it becomes a pulp of bloody flesh, they all become the same. If you want to blame, blame it on the fact that you were too popular. Even when I was thousands of miles away, my silver ants had already noticed the scent on your body. I was going to say it was a pungent smell, but this guy's scent wasn't bad at all. In that case, it's time for me to take action. The moment you appear, I will kill you with one strike. We are able to meet, so. I should give him a tiny surprise at being discovered. Hunter, you are prey. He's coming. Demonic cultivator that worships evil, come out and die. What's going on? I specifically hid my aura to the max. How did he discover me? 
to think he damaged me. Wasn't he only at the third rank, great completion? Trying to ambush me? Are you tired of living? Fourth rank, great completion. How did he break through so fast? In the image Chong Yin sent before he died, he was clearly at third rank, great completion. Enough nonsense. Come out. So what if you are at fourth rank, great completion? This venerable one is at the fifth rank. I must kill you today. You coward, where did you hide? Demonic Beast Two-Headed Flame Lion Level 53 Demonic Cultivator Chong Hui Level 52 Demonic Beast Silver Giant Ant Level 51 Level 51, 52, 53 All three of them are monsters with domain. To deal with all three at once, even a fifth rank cultivator would have some trouble, let alone someone at fourth rank great completion. After all, demonic cultivators always fight in greater numbers, how shameless. But, I can do it. Slowed sound. Normal attack. Where are you hiding? You piece of trash. There. Silver shield. What kind of monster is he? Why is his sword chi as condensed as rain droplets? It seems like with my current sword chi, I am unable to break through the abilities of a fifth rank demonic cultivator. That shield, is that the ability obtained by that little ant when it reached the fifth rank? Demonic beasts and cultivators are different. After the fifth rank, cultivators obtain domain, while demonic beasts will obtain a special ability of incredible power. In that case, I will use a different slash. That guy's spiritual energy is depleted. Kill him with me. This combination is good. One is a tamer, one is an attacker while the other is a defensive tank. But, my second slash. Is not something a tough body can block. Sword heart. This is bad. It's a type of ability that targets the divine soul. This cannot be resisted by the body. If I get hit once, I would be dead. But my domain can handle this. Demonic domain spider's web. Come in, Lu Chao Ge. I don't know the effects of his domain. I can't let myself be sucked in. Lu Chao Ge, do you only know how to run? The Lu Chao Ge that is reputed to ensnare hearts of others with just a single glance is nothing more but a small fry. This guy breakthroughs way too quickly. He is completely different from what I expected. My only way is to anger him into an all-out brawl. This is my only chance. The longer I delay this battle, the sooner Bei Zhou's cultivators will gather here. That would be the worst. You wanted to anger me and end this battle as soon as possible, am I right? So what? Unless, you are not confident of winning by yourself? He is indeed what I expected. Since he is trying to delay time, I will just infuriate you further. Trying to anger me? Your petty tricks are so insignificant. Hey, so what if it's true? You have already fallen into my domain. You can't escape, Lu Chowga. Lu Lu Chowga, you are Lu Chowga? A glance at Chow Ji will ensnare your heart. Kidnapping normal people, is this the way of a fifth rank demonic cultivator? So what if it is? You are about to be turned into a pool of blood anyways. Destroy him. I was originally going to spend these EXP after the mission, but since you are so tough, it's the same if I level it up now. Sword Intent Level 5 Consumed 16 million EXP Sword Intent Level 5 Consumed 16 million EXP. What the hell? 32 million EXP. My heart is bleeding. Chung Hui, I'm gonna kill you. W what is that? Why is this visual effect so dramatic? This is the feeling of breaking through of the sword heart and sword intent, but even for a sixth rank master like me, my upgrade isn't as ridiculous as this heaven and earth changing phenomena.
What is that? Is this an illusion? Or is it a mirage? Why is my sword acting like this? It's trembling. Such a grandiose effect. This is definitely Lu Chaoga. He is broken through again. Big headed ding dong level 12. It really looks like it. Only he will cause such a dramatic visual effect. Quickly, let's go and see. He should be nearby. We are witnessing history. How could I miss this? No matter how far it is, I have to see it for myself. This level of breakthrough is the same as a 7th rank stepping into the 8th rank. Lu Chao Ge. It's you again. What have you done this time? To think that my sword is radiating fear. If I don't kill you, I won't be able to satisfy my thirst for vengeance. This guy, what kind of existence is he? The phenomena from this breakthrough is even more majestic than the breakthroughs of the Purple Moon cult's higher-ups. Is the visual effect so grand? But, it's about time to end this. Chong Hui, you are wrong about many things. Actually, I have the same thought as you. Now, let's end this battle as soon as possible. Sword Heart Chong Hui, ah, uh, Chong Hui, I wanted to end this quickly because I don't want others to steal my rank up mission. You think that I have stepped into your trap? You are utterly and completely wrong. It was you who extended your neck into my guillotine. I will not lose to a cultivator who is only at the fourth rank, great completion. I will avenge Chong Hui's death. I will use your blood and flesh as an offering for my brother. Lu Chao Ge and that demonic cultivator are fighting each other. Don't you die at the hands of the demonic cultivator, Lu Chao Ge. The one to slash you into pieces will be me. Faster. Faster. Lu Chao's life is mine. He's still alive. He's still alive. Come down and beg for death. How did he know I was coming? Where did I reveal my true intentions? That's right, it must be when I proposed that soul search. But so what? You were waiting for me, but you must have exhausted all your energy by now. You are indeed very powerful, defeating three opponents at the level of having a domain while not having one yourself. You managed to kill them without severe injuries. This was a marvelous victory. How long are you going to spew nonsense? Aren't you going to make your move? Another cultivator, is he Lu Chaoga's ally? But the enemy is already dead. Sect leader Lu really has a way of saying. The truth. Flying shorts form. Lu Chao Ge, surely you aren't belittling me just because you won against me once on Chun Chiu stage, are you? Of course I am, why won't I? Ha ha, then let me show you, a real sword domain. Zhao Ji Qi, 6th rank 7th heavenly layer, I will show you why I'm at 6th rank. This venerable one's complete sword domain is able to steal swords at a radius of 10 miles, living up to the title of tens of thousands of swords drawn. Are all those swords? Where are you going? Stop, quickly. Don't go. What is happening there? Why can't I control my sword? Is a top expert at 6th rank and above using a domain? Lu Chao Ge, watch carefully. This is this venerable one's true sword domain. Chun Chiu Mountain Elder Zhao Ji Qi was passing by this place when he happened to witness Mo Sex Sect leader Lu being killed by a demonic cultivator. There was no corpse because the demonic beasts devoured him fully. In the end, Zhao Ji Qi avenged Sect leader Lu and borrowed swords to kill the fifth rank demonic cultivator. Lu Chaoga, regarding this ending, are you satisfied with it? You fool. What a shame, from your aura, it looks like you are one step away from reaching 5th rank. If you had become a great cultivator, you would be the most shockingly talented great sword cultivator in the entire Tianxian world. 
but what a shame you didn't get a chance to enter the fifth rank. What a fool. What is that object? You will soon find out. What are you doing? But no matter what you do, you will still end up dying. No, this time, it's still my win. Nonsense. I will tear you into a million pieces. Ah. Chao Ji, your guess was wrong. Marshall Brother Zhao Ji Chi did not amplify jealousy. No? He amplified wrath. Marshall Brother Zhao may seem like a gentleman, but actually he has been suppressing his wrath all this while. According to rumors, during the hunt for Bei Zhou's demonic cult Huang Quan, Marshall Brother Zhao released his wrath. Devil. Those who had seen it all said that Marshall Brother Zhao looks like a devil when he released his wrath. Lu Chao Ji. In the end. You are still torn into pieces by me. Ha ha ha. Oh? Is that so? Stop your pretentious act. Die. Can you survive this? Oh? Is that so? 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 What kind of demonic art are you using? Where are you hiding? I will kill. 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 Kill you. Ah. Pantu, pantu, pant. Pant, I won. I won. What's going on? How did it become nighttime? It was daytime just a moment ago. No, no. That is not the moon, that is not. That is. It's that orb. It's the orb that Lu Chao Ge took out. That is, that is. Oh? Is that so? I will kill you. I will kill you. Ha ha ha. I won. In the end, it was my victory. Lu Chao Ge. My blood? W what is going on? How did I? How did I get hurt? I was always. I wanted to cut off your head, but who knew that your neck was so tough? Oh well, I shall stab your weak point first. Didn't you say that I have no chance of entering the fifth rank? But right now. Fifth rank. I've reached the realm of a great cultivator. Now, I can sever your neck. Break. I won. Do you know why you lost? It was because of your domain. You separated your divine sense into a thousand pieces in order to control all these flying swords. Furthermore, Moon Dew can control the state of mind of an eighth rank and below even though it was a one-time use, it was enough. As long as it's water, you are all under my control. Let's go there quickly. My sword was sucked that way. I can sense the aura of a great cultivator and a great demonic cultivator. It looks like they are battling. Let's go see. I wonder which senior triggered such a massive heaven and earth phenomena. I'm so excited. Wait, what is that over there? It's our swords. A demonic cultivator borrowed your swords, but he was killed by this venerable. I'm returning the swords back to everyone. All the precious items have been collected, next, hmm? Because I have broken through the fifth rank, the power within my power is starting to fluctuate. The first is this power of water. I have to quickly find a place to stabilize my cultivation. If not, no matter where I go, the rain would not stop. I almost forgot about her. She must be the poor soul that was abducted by Chong Hui. I will release her. This kid is not suited for cultivation. 
What's going on? I only used a very small amount of sword chi. Could it be that my domain is taking shape? Your current state is not very good. May I ask who this senior is? I came from the sword sex black bamboo forest. I'm Ji Chang Kong's senior brother. I greet senior sword master. Why don't you retreat here and I will protect you? I originally wanted to find a hiding place to retreat, but after all, I just killed the elder of Chuenchio Mountain, but there is actually a sword master protecting me, so I can retreat anywhere. Only if. What senior sword master think of me killing the elder of Chuenchio Mountain? Since he wants to kill you, it is appropriate for you to fight back and kill him. This seems to be a simple truth, but it obviously favors me. After all, Senior Sword Master doesn't know why Zhao Zhichi wanted to kill me. And for Chuenchio Mountain. I will take care of any flying sword passing by, so you don't need to worry about the subsequent trivial matters. Hey, hey, hey. What's the situation? Isn't Sword Master being too nice to me? This is not a simple matter. He is going to protect me with the reputation of Sword Master. Is it possible that Senior Sword Master treats me as one of his own juniors because Xiao Lizi is his junior apprentice? Although I'm not sure, but if I don't hug your thighs, then I am still a human being. Then I would trouble you seniors. Will the Black Bamboo Leaves of the Sword Master bring any fortuitous encounters? System Detection It's really just ordinary bamboo leaf. Then, let me start collecting rewards. My sword. I found you. Baby. My lifeblood. It's over there. Hey everyone, what do you feel on your sword? Ching Ping, you feel the sword. It brought back very complicated emotions. There is awe, there is fear, there is disgust. What happened there? Hiss. Open the forum now. Route 13, Chaoga is about to leave Chuenchio Mountain. Hurry up, let's go intercept him. Why is there no news about such a big movement? Has war correspondent Chi Xian gone? Hateful. This leader is becoming more and more mysterious. This damn mystery. The record of Su Kuen here is obviously wrong. Why can a strange beast like Su Kuen sing and dance? It's really unreasonable. Um? Do you want to condense your own sword domain? When a monk enters the five realms, he will gather his own domain. Some are ordinary, some are special, some are weak, and some are extremely powerful. What kind of domain will you condense? Junior brother won't be angry if you feel it a little bit, right? Um, there is such a rogue sword domain in this world. Really? The existence of Domain is indeed world-changing. His Domain can actually steal the power of everything around him. Even the power of heaven and earth. The devoured power was sucked into himself. In this strange Domain, the Domain Master should never run out of strength. Interesting, really interesting, I haven't seen such a unique Domain in hundreds of years. It's a pity that this is not Sword Realm, but it is still very good. If his domain can still grow and change in the future. When facing an enemy, no one can defeat him. If this domain could select its own target for a single extraction, that would be even more incredible. But if this child breaks through the nine realms, then his. Isn't that the legendary realm of immortals above the nine realms, where one can control the heaven and earth for one's own use? Calm down, this is all fantasy and not really feasible. Moreover, the current domain limit of this child does not seem to be high, and it may not be able to grow to that point. Read a book and meditate. This, this is. The second domain. It's actually the one I know so well, sword domain. A moment ago, come, come. Come, the Sword Master is personally protecting me. Now I can safely and boldly receive the reward. System, get out. Promotion tasks, 
counterattack and kill the five realm demon cultivator Chong we ambushing on the road. Mission status completed. 100% completion. You have received a special reward. Sword Domain. Weso, Sword Domain. Heart Killing, Sword Domain. Sishing, Special Reward Epic Sword Domain. Choose one of three. Please make your choice. The three purple level sword realms all seem to be good, so who should I choose? Huh? I haven't chosen it yet? Why are there special effects again? Are special effects free of charge? Congratulations on completing the promotion task. Your realm has been broken through, and you have awakened your own domain. My own domain? There is still one. Is this special effect really free of charge? I. My body is automatically absorbing the spiritual energy around me for my use. This is my own domain? You have awakened your own domain, named Mythical Factory Creation Ball. Human Immortal. Effect 1 Stealing Spirits. Absorb the power of everything within a radius of 1 mile and turn it into its own spiritual power. Effect 2 Spirit Killing. Select the target and extract a large amount of spiritual power from a single target. The extraction speed is 1% of the selected target's maximum spiritual power value per minute. Effect 3 Ascension to Immortality When the spiritual power absorbed reaches 200% of the self, this state can be triggered and all attributes will be increased by 50%. Note, all effects of Domain Immortal increase with the host's level and cannot be upgraded independently. 1 million experience points have been consumed for automatic activation. Damn it! Orange Level Sword Domain the effect of stealing souls is equal to unlimited mana regeneration. Not to mention, the effect of slaying souls is simply unbelievable. As long as I open this domain, no opponent within a mile can survive 100 minutes in front of me. Wait, 100 minutes a sword master of this level could kill me instantly with one strike, right? Ha, huh, it's good for fighting enemies on the same level, but it's a bit useless for fighting enemies above level. However, it is good to be able to continuously fill up the mana. After all, even a 1% mana level like the Swordmaster can directly fill me up. Really magical instant recharging technology. But the most powerful one has to be this. I can trigger it directly by drawing the sword for one minute and all attributes will increase by 50%. It is very exaggerated. It only takes a little swordsmanship to increase it by 10%. Effect 3 the Ascension to Immortality When the spiritual power absorbed reaches 200% of the self, this state can be triggered and all attributes will be increased by 50%. This thing is equivalent to 5 points of swordsmanship qualification, defense qualification, agility qualification. Outrageous, really outrageous, worthy of being called an immortal. But... You will also have to deduct experience points in the domain where I awakened myself you are really a vampire you dog system. Note, all effects of domain immortal increase with the host's level and cannot be upgraded independently. One million experience points have been consumed for automatic activation. However, this thing can be improved according to my level up. When I reach the 7th and 8th realms, maybe I can draw 20% in one minute, then this will be interesting. No one can stand in front of me for five minutes. After five minutes, they all have to be emptied by me and lie down. Hum. Hey, no, I was the one who got ripped off in the past. As expected, things have turned, and now it's my turn to hollow out others. Speaking of which, if I keep talking about this to Sinyan, will I be able to break through her defenses? What are you thinking about? I still haven't received anything. Let's think about this kind of thing later at night. All three are purple level high grade ones, only one step away from my human immortal. There is no detailed information, so the choice can only be based on intuition. Sword domain, to be gentle, the sword domain is a method that can only be used against the enemy. To be gentle to the enemy is to be cruel to oneself, so eliminate it first. Sword domain. Heart killing. Sword Domain Cishin. Killing sounds cool, 
But if the effect is turned on and you lose your mind while killing and stacking attack power, you will become a berserker. That is not my style. From this point of view, this kind of heart killing is the most suitable for me. Killing the heart, killing people to kill the heart, high level slap in the face, this is in line with my identity. So, should I choose it? Can this purple grade high quality sword domain, the heart cutting domain, really be stronger than the orange grade innate divine power, the mind sword? If the effect of this sword domain is to influence the opponent's mindset within a radius of one li, then its effectiveness is actually inferior to the heart sword after all, the mind sword can be unleashed at any time, catching the enemy off guard. But the unfolding of the sword domain is just too flashy and extravagant. So, what should I choose in the end? After careful consideration, it seems that Huayro is truly the perfect fit for me. That's it. Since I can activate the Immortal Ascension mode, even if Slaughter makes me lose my sanity, those stacked attacks are the ultimate buff. Hey, this Road Morning Song style is bloody and brutal, but man, it's kinda interesting. Born from imagination after all, my sword. Only move forward, never step back. Congratulations. You have obtained the Epic Sword Realm. It's time to unleash your killer instincts and rise to the top of the battleground. Sword Domain Bed Born, Effect 1, Living Blade, Every Sword Strike, Damage Boosted by 1%. Stack Able up to 50 times. Effect 2, Deadly Blade, With Every Target Slain, Murderous Intent Increases by 1%. This Murderous Intent can be converted into Critical Damage. Stack Able up to 50 times. Sword Domain. The deadly effects are boosted as the host levels up, no autonomous upgrades allowed. This, this isn't going a bit overboard, is it? Just by drawing the sword, I can boost the damage. At this stage, it can increase by 50%. This second effect is even more outrageous. Increasing critical damage is not just about boosting the damage, it's about adding ordinary attacks that strike with a blade, and once fully stacked, Death Sword can give me a whopping 100% damage increase. By increasing the body stat value by 50% and stacking it with the power of the Living Sword for an additional 50% damage boost, we're looking at a whopping 150% multiplied by 150% increase in damage, resulting in a mind-blowing 25% damage boost. But wait, there's more. If I add on the guaranteed critical hit from a normal attack, we're talking about a devastating 450% damage hit in one go. And to top it all off, let's add the deadly sword that boosts critical damage by 50%. In other words, if we stack everything to the max, a single swing of my sword will dish out a jaw-dropping 675% damage in its normal state. And it might even go higher. Is it even possible to annihilate five peak level opponents with just one sword strike when fully stacked? Unbelievable. If I could stack up and fight that little brat again, I probably wouldn't even need the assistance of Moon Gaze. I could go head to head with him with sheer force. Outrageous. These two swordsmen are absolutely outrageous. They may seem ordinary, but they possess a terrifying power. Killing, it's killing, baby. Behold, the extraordinary realm of dual swords. One, a sword domain never before witnessed, and the other, astonishingly identical to the legendary sword domain of the ancestral master, Lu Li. After a millennium-long slumber, someone has awakened with a sword domain that mirrors the ancestral masters in every conceivable way. No way, no way is all of this just a coincidence. It's gotta be fate. That black flute, and now the sword domain too, are both so badass. Lu Chaoga, he's one hell of a unique and extraordinary individual. Looks like the heavens haven't given up on us humans after all. But, time is running out, it's now or never. You gotta go faster, faster than ever. Master, I've brought Jiang Shishu here. I know, Jiang Shimi, please have a seat. What's up, senior sister? What brings you to me? Hey there, sister. Are you planning to catch the screening of the Chronicles of Spring and Autumn tomorrow? Yeah. 
Jiang Junior's sister is truly stunning. Oh no, is senior sister going to force me to wear all sorts of skirts again to fulfill her so-called beauty standards? I can't beat her in a fight, and she always gets her way. Don't worry, junior sister, I'm not some villain, you know. Um, you're not a bad person, you're just a rogue who forces people to change their clothes. Hey, little apprentice, I actually have something to discuss with you. Finally, after all the circling and hesitations, it had to happen. Can you believe our master actually went ahead and discussed that with Senior Jiang? Am I hearing things? Shouldn't I be somewhere else? Shouldn't I just slip away quietly? Sneak away, perhaps? Sis, just spill it already. I made a pact with Lu Chaoga, promising to reveal my divine essence to him once he reaches the seventh realm. Ah, ah, ah. Master actually said it out loud. She even used the word injection so dangerously. Quite daring, indeed. What on earth is this word injection supposed? To accomplish, it's just mind-blowing. Oh no, it's all over. Everything is ruined. Shen Yun? Is it supposed to be some kind of rejuvenating power? Could it be that my junior sister has no idea what dual cultivation is? Oh, by the way, junior sister is practicing body refining. Double cultivation. That's right. What do you mean, senior sister, you want to cultivate with Chaoga? Yeah. Master, how can you be so calm about this? Don't worry, junior sister, Lu Chaoga actually has no idea about the specifics of our agreement. And the reason I made this choice is because he is simply the most perfect candidate. Oh, right. It's the chosen one who will attain my divine grace, not just any random person. Just a divine embrace, no meddling in each other's lives. And we will only intertwine once. You got it now, junior sister? Sister, have you gone mad or something? Guizhou Endless Sea Grandpa, it seems that your mood today is unusually bad. Oh no, another vegetable leaf has fallen. No, I spilled the water again. Today, I made the tiniest mistake. Better be more careful and avoid getting on his bad side. My grandfather's legs are not agile, so I really need to show him more tender care. Yo, Yang Shu, listen up, and listen well. Even if it kills you, don't you dare forget this place, got it? Yes. Every time I come here, Grandpa would always say this phrase. But in reality, this place is all just water, impossible to remember. Even if I try to mark it with my divine consciousness, it would be inexplicably scattered. But I remembered the direction and noted down the speed and time that Grandpa flew with his flying contraption. With this method, it also helped me remember this place. After all, as Grandpa says, we must never forget this golden nugget of wisdom. His eyeballs started rolling again. Is Grandpa talking about me? Grandpa actually noticed that my eyeballs couldn't move? I have to stuck my eyeballs. Or else Grandpa will get angry again. I didn't say yours eyeballs, you silly little boy. You deserve a good smack. My eyes just shifted, and I'm not talking about you. What I'm talking about is what lies beneath the sea. The thing beneath the sea, isn't it just water? Could it be that there are sea monsters lurking? Down below, behold the Eye of Chaos, present in all four provinces, it is one of the ancient calamities that spawned chaos in every corner. Ah, in my bloodline, besides guarding this place, we also have the ability to document every single flicker of the eye. I'm getting old, and this burden will eventually fall upon your shoulders, my dear. In recent years, the activities of the Eye of Chaos have become increasingly frequent. It's like a whirlwind, swirling with intensity and unpredictability. The Eye of Chaos is at the bottom of the sea. Why don't you go destroy it with Grandpa Jin Zun? Destroy it? Even the mighty great emperor at the peak of the Nine Realms and countless ancient powerhouses couldn't lay a finger on it. Nowadays, even the Sword Sovereign is merely at the Eighth Realm, so how could they possibly destroy it? 
But what if someone were to break through the nine realms? To break through the nine realms? There hasn't been anyone in the world who has accomplished such a feat, not even the legendary Greek emperor. The Grand Master said that the records of the past are meant to be shattered by future generations, like a challenge waiting to be conquered. H.M.? Having great ambitions is certainly a good thing, but if one becomes excessively arrogant, it will bring Harwell only life on themselves. You must not learn the bad habit of making arrogant boasts like him. But is it true that my master truly thinks that way? All right, I know your master is quite remarkable. His reputation now carries some weight throughout the entire Tianxian city. I have high hopes for him as well, and I hope he can surpass us old folks. He definitely will. Never mind the cultivation of your master and how he excels in his practice. Just the ability to earn the respect and admiration of your young disciples is enough to make me envious. That kid, maybe he can really forge a path different from us old folks. Puff. I really can't help it. I can only blame Uncle Jiang. Master Lu and Master Jiang are Taoist couples, and Xing Yun is a dual cultivation that only Taoist couples can do. And Master wants to do dual cultivation with Master Lu, so what's the relationship between them? I also think Master must have gone mad. The key point is how on earth could she talk to Master Jiang about such a thing straight to the point? If you do it back secretly. But if Master can discuss this kind of matter with Uncle Jiang, then maybe I can. No way, calm down. What happened to that child? Junior sister, how could possibly I become possessed by demons? Once you reach the state of unity, it's impossible for inner demons to arise. Is this about the matter of inner demons? Sister is deliberately playing dumb with me. Perhaps she's hiding something from me. Chao Ge is indeed extraordinary, but he's not the only talented one in the entire Tianxian realm. But why would Sister choose my Chao Ge, who has just started to show some progress on the cultivation path? It's so obvious, something's not right. Are you hiding sis something from me? Sister should not have told me this matter. Junior sister is going to meditate on spring and autumn tomorrow, so I will leave for now. Master, may I ask why you have chosen to challenge Master Jiang today? There will come a day when everything will be revealed, and Lu Chaoga is ultimately the most suitable candidate. Oh, Master, how do you manage to speak these words so calmly? Chan Chan, how many years has it been since I last ventured beyond the Nine Realms in the Tianqian Realm? It must have been thousands of years, right? Why is Master suddenly asking about this? Maybe, after Lu Chaoga gets my charm, it will be an opportunity for him to break through the Nine Realms. You mean, Lu Shiquan is very likely to become the only Nine-level genius in our Tianqian world in 10,000 years? Maybe. Probably. However, there is another person in Qingzhou who may also enter the Nine Realms. There is another person in Qingzhou who is like Master Lu. Could Qingzhou be a haven for prodigies? Now both domains are stable, plus upgrades, sword intent, heart sword, etc. It actually costs nearly 60 million experience points in one breath. All this back and forth, the dog system is truly shady. Successful kill Zhao Qi additional reward of 1.4% in progress for the main quest in the northern province. Sure enough, Zhao Zhiqi is one of the main bosses. But this 1.4% is not as good as the Snow Wolf King. Seriously, people are not as good as the animals. Young friend? Are you finally awake? Oh my god. I almost forgot that you are also here. Thank you, senior, for protecting me. Oh, it's no big deal. Let's chat as we walk all right, lead the way, senior. Hey, now that I've become a great sword cultivator, what's the point of having this flying artifact? Even without the aid of water force, I can soar through the sky with ease now. Lu Chaoga is really like banishing an immortal.
This torrential rain born from the surging power of the heavens and earth withing me should not bring harm to ordinary people. Instead, it is a manifestation of a new. This, this, effortlessly summoning wind and rain with a flick of the wrist. This is not like banishing an immortal. Lu Chaoga clearly thinks he is banishing an immortal. Fighting with life and death and being distracted by ordinary people's lives, this person's character is indeed good. In this case, there are some things that should be known to him. Ah, the world of this young man is still mysterious. Swordmaster wants to talk to me, but I don't know what he wants to talk about. Wouldn't he be like Xiao Lizi's master again, who saw that I was extremely talented and wanted to accept me as his disciple? That's not possible. No one can be my master except my father. I'm a little curious about you too, Sword Domains. Why don't you show me a glimpse? Of course. You scared me for a moment. I only have to show the Sword Domain, that's all. Hold on a sec. Don't I have a Purple Moon Society stronghold map? Doesn't it require level 50 players to form a team to go there? If I team up with the current number one swordsman to go. Senior, my sword domain is quite special. It is too eye-catching when used in the air. I know a good place. How about we go there and I show it? Very well, then lead the way. All right, follow me, senior. Fantastic. The sword master himself teams up with me. Who else could come up with such a brilliant plan? Look, isn't that Lu Chaoga over there? Qing Zhou, yeah. In Qing Zhou, everyone knows the face of Lu Chaoga. He's famous far and wide. But isn't he a fourth realm cultivator? How is he flying without the use of a flying artifact? Could it be that he has surpassed the fifth realm and become a mighty sword cultivator? How, how long has it been since then? Quick, look. Lu Chaoga is soaring through the sky. That's Lu Chaoga. I could never forget that face, even if I were a ghost. Has he leveled up? Isn't it level 50 required to fly? All I see here are question marks. Either my memory is failing me, or my system can't even recognize his name. I need to quickly record a video. This post is going to go viral for sure. Quick, look. Let's record like that kid too. Yes, we can't let him hog all the limelight. Damn it. You guys are too quick to react. Get ready to record, for this time, it's going to set the stage of the Tianqian Forum on fire again. After all, the person standing beside me is truly a figure at the pinnacle of Qingzhou. What are you doing? Bow your heads and pay your respects. What's going on? We're not members of the Ink Gate. Why should we pay our respects? Could it be that Qingzhou has become the territory of the Ink Gate now? Do you really not know the person next to Lu Chaogas? Why yes, that's. The one who soars alongside the morning song is none other than the warriors of Qingzhou. Yes, that's right. The legendary sword master of all time. That. That's the sword venerable. The sword venerable, the head of the four divine swords in Gingju. The one who stands above all the swordsmen in Qingzhou, the sword venerable. Oh, come on. I was reading the strategy guide, and it said that the Momin is just one of the hundred sects in Gingju, even though Lu Chaoga is a young prodigy, he's not qualified to be on par with the sword venerable, right? See, I knew it. It's just an exaggeration again. You guys, you guys, do you guys seriously not recognize the number one divine sword in Gingju? The disciple of Gingju Lightning Gate pays respects to the word master. The disciple of Gingju Kuen Fist Gate pays respects to the sword master. The disciple of Qingzhou Five Tiger Broadsword Gate pay respects to the sword master. The disciple of Gingju Golden Arch Gate pays respects to the sword master. What the heck? Is it true? Low flying has caused quite a bit of trouble for everyone. Why don't we fly higher instead? All right. The sword master is indeed powerful in Qingzhou. In a few years, I will probably have such a reputation, right? 
This kid is actually smart. He uses the power of heaven and earth to assist his flight, which consumes less spiritual energy and can speed up a lot. When we reach a secluded place, it will be time to discuss some important matters with him. After all, he will find out sooner or later. Elder, in fact, the destination of my journey this time is Purple Moon Sect Altar that accidentally I learned about. I originally intended to seek the assistance of Senior to Eridak Purple Moon Society, but since I didn't explain it beforehand, I felt a twing in my heart. Wait. You actually know the location of the Purple Moon Society. It was just a fortunate coincidence that stumbled upon it. The Sword Sovereign is incredible percept, so by the time we reach Sacred Altar, it might be saved too lad late. It's better to explain now, to avoid being looked down upon by the Sword Sovereign, after all, even if he doesn't go, I can defeat it alone. It just so happens that I also have something to tell you regarding the Purple Moon Society. How much do you know about the Society? To be honest, there is not much. But what I do know is that T they a legendary group of supernatural enthusiasts for the mystical moonlight of. Based on the information I currently have, it seems that refers to the heart of the Azure Emperor. Yes, indeed. It's truly. Before, it was said that the demon cultivator can rely on devouring to enhance their cultivation and devouring the heart of the Azure Emperor represents devouring the power of the Azure Emperor. But why would these demon cultivators want to devour the heart of someone who disappeared 10,000 years ago? This doesn't make sense. It sounds like a cult. How much do you know about the origins of demon cultivation? I know very little about demon cultivators. I only know that they are somewhat related to strange beasts. All I know about them is that they've got bounties on their heads and you can score rewards for taking them out. It's a basic understanding. Yes, demon cultivators and alien beasts are inherently entangled. But let me tell L.U. this tale stretches far beyond, and truth, the realm of demonic cultivation wasn't always as it is now. The ancient beasts crawled out from the Eye of Chaos and set foot around Tianqian. They were powerful and terrifying, like a huge disaster sweeping the world. Every ancient mythical beast possesses the power of eight or even nine realms, making them as rare as phoenix feathers and unicorn horns even in the flourishing realm of cultivation. Everyone fought desperately, and for the first time in the history of the cultivation realm, they stood united against a common enemy. But it wasn't until the intervention of the heavenly path that the catastrophe began to ease slightly. Even with their participation in the battle, the human race remains at a disadvantage. As time goes on, the realm of Tianqian will be completely destroyed under the ancient savage beast's sharp fangs and claws. That sounds terrifying. How on earth did the emperor and his allies manage to win? It's because of the demon cultivator. Demonic cultivators? Demonic cultivator who control wicked and unruly spirit beasts. How on earth could those fellows possibly safeguard the Tianqian realm? Got it. The ancient demon cultivator has manipulated some of the ancient exotic beasts and joined that catastrophic event, so this is how it was. That's right, you are indeed clever. But the demon cultivator can only beasts that are same cult in the level as themselves, and they must also possess bloodline power the exotic beasts within their own bodies, and the ancient era exotic beasts were just beginning to emerge. How could there possibly be someone with the bloodline of an exotic beast? But there is. There's this one person who risked their life to infuse the blood of an ancient exotic beast into their own body. No way, you're kidding, right? That's right, it's Azure Emperor. He risked his life and infused himself with the blood of a savage beast. He is the very first monster cultivator. The first demon cultivator. If you fuse the blood of alien beasts incorrectly, your body will explode and die. This secret is known to only a few people in the world, and you should be clear about its benefits. Dare you talk about this kind of thing outside? The demon cultivators that have plagued Chinjo for thousands of years is the bloodline left by our hero centuries ago. Damn it, once this kind of thing spreads, the Tianqian world will collapse. The ancient was was more brutal than you and I know. In addition, yo, countless ancient beasts, the casualties became more and more severe. 
The ghost energy and death energy remaining on the Tianqian land gathered together, and the almost unkillable Pluto was born. Moreover, Pluto continued to absorb the breath of more LL fallen monks and dead beasts, strengthen himself, and create countless armies of ghosts. Even if the Qing Emperor was the Eternal Emperor, if he had done nothing, the situation of the human race would only be a one-sided defeat. So, at this time, he fused the blood of alien beasts and turned himself into a half-demon body, becoming the first demon cultivator. Yes, that was the only way. Since ancient times, the union between a human and a demon will only give birth to a descendant of the mother's clan, either a human or a demon. There is no such thing as a half-demon. And this is the secret as to why Qingdi is half-demon. I thought that Qingdi was half-demon. I thought he was born to a demon father and a mother. I was just too ignorant. The greatness of the Qing Emperor is beyond my imagination. After Qingdi succeeded in merging the blood of alien beasts, many powerful men in the world successively fused the blood of many alien beasts. This group of people were the first batch of demon cultivators in ancient times. After accommodating the power of alien beasts, the strength of these powerful men has been strengthened to a certain extent. In addition, it can cause bloodline suppression and control of alien beasts, which directly reverses the situation of the battle. It's a bit like learning from the barbarians and using their skills to defeat the barbarians, but here comes the question, haven't all the demon cultivators become bloodthirsty and cruel due to the influence of the blood of alien beasts? If a group of people like that turned into murderous and cruel people, wouldn't the Tianqian world be over a long time ago? Why does it still exist today? Master, after all, demon cultivators are different from ordinary people. The blood of alien beasts will affect their minds. By then, wouldn't it cause an even greater disaster to Tianqian? You have to understand, who are those people who become demon cultivators? I am now known as the leader of the Four Divine Swords in Qingzhou, the Sword Master of the Sword Sect, a figure respected by everyone in Qingzhou, but I know clearly that with my current Eighth Realm strength, if I participated in that ancient battle, I would not even be qualified to become a demon cultivator. Also, those ancient geniuses want to suppress the influence of the bloodline of mere alien beasts, which can only be described as relaxed and happy. After all, some things, for some people, are regarded as karma and inner demons, affecting their entire lives. But for some people with a stable Taoist mind, it only affects their mood for a few days. However, problems gradually appeared among the descendants of this group of people. The descendants of cultivators and monsters who merged the blood of alien beasts actually inherited the power of the blood. The baby could not suppress the curse and the power of blood, so the demon cultivator that everyone had to kill now was born, but I have a question. Didn't any of these talented seniors fall down? If everyone acted for the sake of righteousness, perhaps the inheritance of demon cultivators would not be passed down. Human hearts are very complicated. It's exactly what I thought. Maybe someone betrayed their former camp for the sake of future generations. Now I understand why Ziyue wants to devour the heart of the Qing Emperor. After all, the Qing Emperor is the most powerful demon cultivator. The descendants of heroes have now become demon cultivators causing trouble in the world. Practitioners and ordinary people in the new era are grateful to these ancestors and have their swords against their descendants. This damned world. You have successfully discovered hidden information, information level, orange. Converting rewards. I didn't do anything, I just listened to the legend, and I got the sword master for nothing. This sword master is simply full of treasures. Why is this guy suddenly looking at me like that? You have received a reward of 10 million points. Listening to Jinzuin's words is like turning over two pages of spring and autumn. You have obtained a special item, clues to the heart of green energy one. Note, only players whose level is higher than level 60 can check it. Eh? What? This. This is. A clue to the Qing Emperor's heart. Damn it. System, you gave me a big wave. Calm down. The Sword Sovereign is right next to me. 
After all, he is the number one in Qingzhou. He seemed quite happy just now, but after a moment, he became calm again. Could it be that my words had some impact on him? Unfortunately, it seems that I can only investigate the clues of the first ring after reaching the sixth realm. You have obtained a special item, exclusive discount of Qing Market 1. Note, players can view it after reaching level 60. It seems that finding the location of the Qing Emperor's heart is not that easy. Indeed, the coveted passages are fraught with danger, and a slight mistake could extinguish millions of lives. You have obtained a special item, Clue of the Qing Emperor's Heart. Unable to view. Unable to view. But there's an issue with your hint. It doesn't explain how many clues are needed to find the Qing Emperor's Heart. What if you have 10,000 clues behind this? Players can view it after reaching level 60. Then what's the point of me playing this game? Oh, by the way, there's something I can't figure out. What about the key? It seems with so many secrets, it'll take at least a century to unravel them. Wait, am I not the one with minions? I have a group of endlessly resurrecting, loyal and dedicated, silly players. Let them help me find clues, isn't that convenient and useful? After returning to the sect, let's cultivate these silly players properly. Give them tasks, add some substantial rewards, and they'll clamor for more, the best minions ever. After all, players are overpowered, they can stack levels just with experience points. If they all break level 50, the scene is beyond imagination. If this group of silly players, who resurrect and get stronger with each battle, appears in ancient times, even ancient beasts would have to bow down. After all, what players boast about is. After all, players are using cheats, they can stack levels just by relying on experience points. The fourth catastrophe is not just an empty name. Properly utilizing players is the greatest reliance of the Tianqian realm. When I go back, I'll treat them well. Oh, right, there's one more thing, senior. It seems the Eye of Chaos still exists. Will there be another calamity in the future? Recently, the fluctuations of the Eye of Chaos have reached the peak in over 10,000. In the endless seas of the four states, there are four world-destroying active volcanoes. There will be continuous spawns of monsters. No need to worry about experience packs for the silly players. Huh, what's up with this kid? Hearing such words, he doesn't seem worried at all. Actually, there's a hint of joy. Senior, I've always been curious. Are the ancient beasts born from the Eye of Chaos, or is the Eye of Chaos just a gateway? If it's the born, what should be done? If it's the latter, what should be done? If it's the born, then destroy that eyeball. If they come, we'll go to their place and cause trouble. Okay. They dare to come and cause trouble, so let's kill them at their home. Good. In that case, in the future, you don't have to be bound by worldly constraints. Just do whatever you want. If someone hinders you, let me know. Wow, Senior is really reliable. He's going to be my backing. Even though there's Saint Ning at the top, having the number one swordsman in Qingzhou, Senior, is even better. Yes, Senior. We're about to reach the coordinates of the Purple Moon Sex Law Altar. Please be careful. Sure enough, Purple Moon Altar is here. Okay, today, let's wipe out this place. The Purple Moon Sex Law Altar, in my previous life, I really rated something like this. According to past experience, there are generally only two level 5 demon cultivators guarding the Law Altar. At this point, smart cuties might ask, what's in the Law Altar? Why not send more people? Why do players need to form a group to deal with just two demon cultivators? Simply put, everything except the physical shell is stored here. And why are there only two level 5 demon cultivators guarding the law altar? Because if three level 5 or higher demon cultivators come to the law altar, they can't suppress the ancient beast. It will come out and devour the demon cultivators. Beasts devouring each other. In the eyes of the ancient beast, demon cultivators are also very delicious. 
I remember when we were clearing the law altar instance back then, we formed a team of dozens of players, all above level 50. This time, I'm going to solo it and reap the rewards. As for the last question, why does a law altar guarded by only two level 5 demon cultivators require dozens of level 50 players to team up for clearance? That's because demon cultivators are inherently powerful, and when they can harness the power of ancient beasts, they become formidable adversaries. Demon cultivators not only fight on their home turf, but can also summon high-level monsters. They are indeed challenging to deal with. Although I used to be a sandbox player, now I am the chosen one. In the past, the things in those formations didn't devour players, but now I'm not a player anymore. I'm not sure if it can swallow me. It's best if Senior doesn't intervene so that the system will recognize it as me soloing. All the experience rewards will be mine. Senior, we've arrived here. Okay, you go ahead and remember to use your two sword domains. I'm looking forward to it. It seems that today, I'll be enjoying this reward alone. All right, Senior, watch closely. You have discovered the Purple Moon Sex Law Altar, and the temporary mission has been triggered. Mission Stage 1, Kill the Guarding Demon Cultivators. Mission Reward, 10 million experience points and a blue-grade item. The rewards are not bad, and there's such a reward in Stage 1, so these two guarding demon cultivators seem formidable. Let's begin. Come out, my lovely experience pets. Who's there? A handsome sword cultivator. Never mind the pretty boy, I can't see through the person behind him. I can't see through him either. Let's go back to the altar. Since we can't see through their cultivation levels, let's awaken the altar to deal with them. No, these two are not right. Why did the villain suddenly grow brains? Spatial restriction. He cut off our retreat. What cultivation level is this? Who is this person? Don't panic, your opponent is me. A sword cultivator who just reached the level 5 realm dares to talk big? I remember who he is. He's Lu Chao Ge. The Lu Chao Ge that's been rumored everywhere in the Tianqian realm recently. Only Lu Chao Ge has such a handsome face. I should have thought of it. What? Didn't my partner Chong Hui go to kill him? Chong Hui must be dead. Damn it. I shouldn't have taken his shift. This formation was supposed to be guarded by him and you. Stop arguing. If you don't act now, I will. Even if you kill Chong Hui, how can you deal with both of us? My darlings, come out. Little green, little blue. Sword Domain Slaughter Harmony must be maintained. Others have two ancient beasts, you can only summon two. Ah Bao Lu Chao Ge. I will bury you together with Ah Bao. Domain Expansion The opponent wants to increase his resistance capabilities, while I want to test the strength of my sword domain, aren't the both of us thinking in a similar way? Ah bow. Ah bow. Go. You are you a voice repeater? Didn't Ah bow just die? Wrestling domain. Immense strength boost. The aura has increased a huge fold. This demonic cultivator's domain turns out to have a support effect. Lu Chao Ge, he was too lazy to remember names, that's why he named them all Ah bow. Don't be too complacent. The immense force of two ramming our bow isn't one where even I can endure. Why did you say something sexual all of a sudden? Sexual? It's expected that your thin body won't be able to handle it. After all, these types of bulls are bound to ruin the fields. The second slash. My domain not only gives our bow increased strength and defense, but it also allows them to run rampant as they wish. Don't even think about escaping by jumping into the air. 
Ah bow. Ah bow. Chase after him. What a good guy. There's even such a move. Isn't that even better? A mere cultivator wants to fight my two demonic beasts in a contest of physical strength? You are clearly seeking death. Ram him to death, ah bow. The 50th slash, sword of life seems to have finished stacking. Marshal Uncle, can you see my sword domain clearly? I see it very clearly. Then I shall not play anymore. Ah bow. Hurry. Hurry and pierce him. Something's wrong. There's something wrong with this person. Sword Domain Slaughter Sword of Life 50 Stacks. Lu Chao GE Overall Damage Increase 50%. This slash, I shall call it. Normal Attack Endless Life. Ah. Blood, there is actually high water content within it. This, this. Lady, don't be afraid. Let me tell you a fun fact. A dead person can no longer want feel afraid. Since ancient times cultivators have always been inferior to demonic cultivators. Don't be too arrogant just because you killed them. You sheathed your sword. Sheathing your sword means that your domain has greatly depleted you. This shows that while your domain is indeed very powerful, you can't keep using it. Now, it's my turn to wear you out. Little green. Little blue. Marshal Uncle, next, please take a look at my second domain. All right. As expected, it's that domain, slaughter, the same as that of the Ancestral Master. Spiritual Snatcher Spiritual Slasher Double Activation T this, this is impossible. This is impossible. How could someone possess two domains? Leave quickly. Don't waste your energy, either you slay me, or you get slain by me. There is absolutely no escape. I will fight you with all my strength. Demonic Domain, Unveil. That's quite fancy. Hmm. A domain that switches form, huh? I have never seen this kind of outfit before in my previous life. It's really something. As long as my powdered scales coat his surroundings and his body, he will die to my demonic flames. Die. Wait. Do you want to say your final words? Delaying time? This is what I wanted. I was originally intending to rely on fighting him in closed combat to delay for time and let my powdered scales coat his entire body, but now the opportunity came knocking on my door. Lady, you are wearing too little. If we fought in close combat, it would be disadvantageous. It turns out you are a pretentious gentleman. Since you think that I will be at a disadvantage, why don't you close your eyes and stand still? No, it's not you that would be disadvantaged. I'm talking about me. For a man like me, if I were to be with someone frivolous like you, my Dow lover back at home would get angry. Asshole. You asshole. I want you dead. I want you totally dead. My demonic flame can burn anything to the ground. No one under the sixth rank is able to withstand this. You have already been completely coated with my powdery scales. You have fallen into my trap. Oh? Is that so? Why don't you try it and let's see? Then I shall do as you wish. Go to hell. W what is going on? My face, my hands, my spiritual energy, why is my spiritual energy empty? W what did you do? You clearly didn't activate any of your domain techniques. Are you talking about this? That was just a move that seemed a little cool, so I just did it casually. 
My human immortal can be unveiled at any moment, as long as I want to. From that start, I have been constantly draining your spiritual energy. You, you. Ass, whole. Looks like she siphoned a lot of spiritual energy to maintain her youthful look. Even if she's a demonic cultivator, she was still a woman. Both of your domains are very powerful in battle. Your fight just now with opponents of the same rank have exceeded my expectations. You're mistaken, Marshal Uncle. It's because they are too weak. This kid. But, the battle here isn't over yet. Something is awake. Do you know why they awaken even despite us not stepping into the array? I know. It's because my human immortal just now absorbed their spiritual energy too. I can feel it. Usually the purple moon cult will feed them with spiritual energy. It must be their first time to be drained of it. After I stole their spiritual energy, these three got a little upset. It looks like they're coming out for a meal to vent their resentment. The dragon soul of a dragonian beast, the bloodline powers of the three-eyed bronze tree, and the bloodline powers of the sky-devouring whale, these three are all eighth-rank great ancient demonic beasts before. This altar is not simple. Three eighth-rank ancient demonic beasts. No wonder even I felt a sense of pressure. Don't worry, right now, they are nothing more than seventh-rank souls. As expected of the Sword Sovereign, one wave of his hand and the pressure from the ancient demonic beasts are gone. I wonder if your human immortal is able to fully absorb these things. Absorb them? Yes. Try absorbing them. The Sword Sovereign is the Sword Sovereign at the end of the day, just one finger and he is able to suppress three demonic beasts who the Purple Moon Cult needed to build a sacrificial altar to feed. Well then, I will suck it with all I got. Damn it, that was a little vicious. I gave one suck and almost spilled everything out. But after I finished absorbing, if I don't activate the effects of Immortal Ascension, what would happen? Will I explode? It couldn't be, could it? Will I really explode? Due to the special traits of the altar, do you want to extract the materialization of their spiritual energy? Materialization? Materialization of spiritual energy? Try it. Extract. Eh? Something is coming out of my mouth? Pooey. So this is the materialization of the ancient demonic beast's spiritual energy? Why do they look so familiar? Hmm? Let me see. System, analyze these three orbs. Altar orb, contains the bloodline powers of the ancient Dragonian beast's divine soul. Altar orb, contains the bloodline powers of the three-eyed bronze tree's divine soul. Altar orb, contains the bloodline powers of the sky-devouring whale's divine soul. The spiritual energy sucked out by human immortal can be compressed into an orb. Doesn't that mean that I can suck infinitely? Very nice. This venerable one shall suck all of you dry. Divine Technique of the Northern Darkness The Great Arts of Energy Metamorphosis Star Swallowing Arts They are all abilities of the sword domain, so why did he give them names which I'd never heard of? Looks like I'm really getting old. The world is now ruled by the youths. But these things are really similar to those things. Is this really a coincidence? It's too lowly of me to spit them out of my mouth every time. I can condense with my fingers too. Condense. And condense. And condense even more. Oh man, how long can these three last? If this carries on, I would be simmered into medicinal dregs. What's going on? Don't tell me these three antiques are going to fight to their last breath. Such a huge altar was completely dried up by me. You have completely sucked the three ancient demonic beasts dry. Since this altar and the demonic beasts depend on each other, by losing the powers of the demonic beasts, the altar was shattered. Furthermore, the power within these three orbs are the powers of the ancient demonic beasts in the altar. 
Your sword domain sealed their spiritual energy. This kind of orbs, I saw something that is extremely similar to it. That thing is called the soul jade. I am collecting soul jades as well. I have two with me now. They are indeed very similar. But even I have no idea why the things my sword domain condenses out will be similar to the soul jades. Marshal Uncle, the power that sealed King Hades into the soul jades, was it Emperor Chain? Complicated expression, yes. So it really is. Your sword domain seems to be the same method Emperor Ching used to seal King Hades. Keep them all. As you are collecting soul jades, these would be useful. So many soul jades? Marshal Uncle, are these all for me? That's right. Since you are collecting them, they will definitely be beneficial to you. Marshal Uncle, why don't you question why I am collecting them? You have your reasons, why should I ask? This pillar of support I'm leaning on sure is dependable. Hey Ting, you are very lucky. Your master has got something big for you again. Get ready to be leveled up. Perhaps I have already forced out history's weakest ninth rank using the soul jades? Even though it's a false ninth rank, it is still a ninth rank nevertheless. While he might not win against other ninth ranks or eighth ranks, won't it still be a walk in the park decimating seventh and sixth ranks? Hey Ting, your future has already been planned out by your master. This is called sitting in your abode. Cheats fall from above. Achoo. Senior brother, have you caught a cold? It looks like I was remembered by someone. When I went down to buy groceries recently, I didn't count the money wrongly, did I? This kid will rather suspect the vendor grandma down the mountain of scolding him behind his back than to dare believe himself to be remembered by his master. You must be tired after using two domains just now. Do you want to meditate on it for a while? Definitely. I killed so many bad demonic cultivators consecutively, I have to see just how much EXP I've gotten. Then I will protect you. Many thanks, Marshal Uncle. You've obtained the EXP reward, 47 million. The rewards for completing the mission, killing the bad guys and destroying the altar has already given me 47 million EXP alone. Kill the demonic cultivator guards, complete it. Destroy the purple moon cult altar, complete it. Kill the demonic cultivator, Jung Sheng, complete it. Kill the demonic cultivator, Chang Tue, complete it. Kill the demonic beasts, Ah Bao, complete it. Mission Description Destroy the Altar Mission Reward, 30 million EXP, so the most impressive reward is this. After all, it's a 7th rank altar, and I destroyed it while being 2 ranks under. If the reward is low, even the system must feel ashamed of itself. Killing the Demonic Cultivator Guards have rewarded you with Blue Grade Item. Do you want to read it? Oh, there's one more piece of equipment too. Read it. Although this blue grade equipment isn't useful to me, my disciples in MO sect only have one sword, and their other equipment are all totally zero. What could it be? Who would it be suited for? A eh? tiny revealing garment blue grade item effect. After wearing it, all attribute resistance is increased by one point. The effect is very good, but this, I would never wear it even in death. But, if this was worn by the right person, Seems like only Little Lizzie is not suited for it. A world where only Little Lizzie is hurt is achieved. Forget it, forget it, I will give it to someone when the time comes. Since this is the first time you destroy an altar, would you like to spend 2 million EXP to read information about the Purple Moon Cult Altar? What kind of information is worth 2 million EXP? Seems like a big secret. Read. Deducted 2 million EXP. The Purple Moon Cult Altar is built in secret by the demon race. The Purple Moon Cult Altar suppresses the powers of ancient demonic beasts. There is a chance for demonic cultivators of the Purple Moon Cult to obtain the powers of ancient demonic beasts through the altar, but failure would let them assimilate into the ancient demonic beasts. Gentle reminder, from the deductions of the system, there could be, be members within your sect capable of absorbing the altar orbs. Wait a second, this 2 million gamble is so worth it. 
Firstly, the Purple Moon Cult Altar is a huge benefit to their cult. It is able to strengthen the abilities of demonic cultivators, and even if the process fails, it could even revive the ancient demonic beasts. Secondly, the Purple Moon Cult Altar isn't built by the demonic cultivators, but by the demon race. There must be a big demon within the core members of the Purple Moon Cult. Demons are a totally different race from demonic cultivators and demonic beasts. They have self-awareness and, at the same time, the strong bodies of demonic beasts. Upon calculations, the demon race is way stronger than demonic cultivators and beasts. If there are shadows of the demon race in this, it seems like things from now on will become more complicated. Whatever, let's look at the other information first. That last line is the most crucial line. Gentle reminder, from the deductions of the system, there could be be members within your sect capable of absorbing the altar orbs. Someone in my MO sect is able to suck the orbs I create. Don't tell me, it's you again? Nice, nice, nice. Won't this form a cycle? I will give all the powers I absorb using star-swallowing arcs to my disciple, then I will use the divine technique of northern darkness to turn his powers into my own. I shall call this master-disciple combo as Condense and Suck. Hiya, I miss home suddenly. I have to get back quickly. Hey! Ha! Hey! Yes, that's the way to strike. Hey! Ha! Hey! Ho! This kid keeps shouting every time she trains. This kind of behavior is not steady at all. When facing real enemies, with this kind of shouting, all the enemies would have already fled. When facing enemies, you have to hide yourself and patiently wait for the right moment. Before killing them with one strike. The more I see, the more I really feel that my disciple isn't similar to me at all. Then who is she like? This venerable one is M.O. Sex Sect Leader, Lu Chao Ge. Brother left for so many days and there isn't a single news from him. How annoying. Naughty Grandpa, I'm so hungry, I. Alright, that's all for today. Very well, Xiao Chiu's next step will be to the canteen. Practice 300 more strikes. Master, you said that Marshall Uncle went to look for Brother? In terms of finding people, although my senior brother isn't as good as me, he will still find the person eventually. I understand now, the Sword Sovereign is way better at finding someone than Master, he will definitely find him. Reverse thinking, this is based on Lu Dong Li's understanding of her Master after spending many days together. Wait, something's not right. Senior brother went to look for Lu Chao Ge, and Lu Chao Ge is extremely gifted, would he? If senior brother took Lu Chao Ge in as a disciple, then won't I lose to him again? Do you think that my senior brother will take him in as a disciple? Master, you spent so much time with Marshall Uncle, shouldn't you know him better? Hey, me understanding him? Both of us have never been on good terms, I don't understand him at all. Master, relax. Since brother said that he doesn't want another master, then naturally that won't happen. Chao Ge is thankful for Senior's care, but I already have a master. Indeed, that kid is one that values kinship. He will never accept anyone other than his father as master. Your master did some thinking and believed that with Lu Chao Ge breaking through so fast, he should be able to become a great sword cultivator in about a year. I wonder what kind of sword domain would he develop? It will definitely be something grandiose, after all brother's personality has always been like that. This venerable one sword domain, unveil. Be more grounded. Brother. Hayes, he really doesn't stay at home at all. This is my final time reading Chun Chiyo. These past 10,000 years, only he managed to hold Chun Chiyo. After reading Chun Chiyo, I will go look for Chao Ji. Senior Sister Saintus wants to create Tian Xian's newest star. Chao Ge could be the first person in 10,000 years to reach the ninth rank, but, but, that would require dual cultivation. With the speed that Chao Ge is breaking through, it won't be long before he becomes a great sword cultivator. When that happens, no matter what, I must be ahead of Senior Sister. 
The time now is for reading Chun Chiyo, I can't have any more messy thoughts. Just like the previous two times, I need to use divine consciousness to touch it. Which page will it turn to this time? I cultivate the flow of the body. If this last visualization isn't able to help me, then the chances of me stepping into the sixth rank great completion stage will be none. I don't even have to think about breaking through to seventh rank. I have never been so conscious about my own rank, yet now, I am suddenly aware of it. If I could reach a higher rank, I might be able to support him. There is much for Chao Ge to do. I can feel that if I am just a little stronger, I will be able to lend him a hand. I am his Tao lover. Naturally, I should be his most reliable support. This is the ninth page. Chun Chiyo. This time, can you give me the strength to support Chao Ge? Hit. Oh no, why is it you? How could I see the wooden dummy as Marshal Uncle Lou? Why am I always so distracted today? Don't train anymore. Go for a walk. A guest is coming. Who is this guest that needs me to go out for a walk? The guest is not someone important. What's important is the thing he is carrying. Senior sister, so you don't welcome me. Turns out the not important guest is the sect leader. Since sect leader and master have things to discuss, I will take my leave. The situation this time is major. I assume that senior sister has already guessed it. It's regarding Lu Chao Ge. H.M.? Didn't he leave Chun Chiu Mountain to return to Qingzhou? Yes, but Zhao Zhichi died. Did he fall to Qi deviation, or did he have retrograde meridian flow and died suddenly? Lu Chao Ge killed him. With Zhao Zhiqi's sixth rank abilities, how can he be killed by Lu Chao Ge, who is only at the fourth rank great completion stage? This situation is too ludicrous. I didn't believe it at first, but the more ridiculous part is Message Dagger. After killing a fifth rank demonic cultivator and demonic beasts, Lu Chao Ge also killed Zhao Zhiqi, who was trying to harm him. The defeat on Chen Chiu stage made Zhao Zhiqi extremely upset and he decided to privately harm Lu Chao Ge to vent his resentment, but ended up being killed by Lu Chao Ge instead. Furthermore, this was when Lu Chao Ge expended a massive amount of energy. How could this thing be possible? Martial Uncle Zhao is at 6th rank, 7th Heavenly Layer stage. Martial Uncle Lu was only at the 4th rank Great Completion stage. Ordinary 4th rank Great Completion cultivators would have. I can't believe it either. But this message was from the Sword Sovereign. The Sword Sex Sword Sovereign? That's right. Furthermore, from the contents of this message, the Sword Sovereign witnessed the whole encounter personally. W witnessed the whole encounter with his own eyes. Since that's the case, then it must be true. The Sword Sovereign words are never false. T. This is way too ridiculous. If that's the truth, then Marshal Uncle Lou isn't human at all. If he's not human, then what is he? I, I don't know too. It's just too astonishing how incredible, after all, Marshal Uncle Zhao at the 6th rank and 7th Heavenly Layer could have killed a cultivator at 5th rank and below in just one move. Humph, perhaps it'll be impossible for others, but not to him. Sect Leader, now that Lu Chao Ge killed an elder of our sect, how do you prepare to handle this issue? Sect Leader won't do something bad to Marshal Uncle Lu right. I intend to speak of this matter now. I shall cleanse Chun Chiu Mountain. Eh? Cleanse Chun Chiu Mountain? Looks like there's more to the contents of the message than what you told us, isn't there? You are right. The message of the Sword Sovereign also revealed that Zhao Zhiqi and Bei Zhou's demonic cultivators, the Underworld Cult, are in cahoots. They even found the Underworld Cult's token in his storage ring. The Underworld Cult has influenced even the elders of my Chun Chiu Mountain. If I don't investigate fully, it will all be too late. I have matters to attend to. I won't stay any longer. I really wanted to ask for news about Marshal Uncle Lu. Did he get injured after a series of fierce battles? Did he send any word? Was there only the message from the Sword Sovereign? Lu Chao Ge, did he send a messaging dagger? 
No. I see. But the sword intent in this messaging dagger is really shocking. You four pinnacles of Tianqian really have some parts in common. To completely immerse yourself in your one passion and hone it to the extreme. This kind of person actually sent a letter on Lu Chao Ji's behalf. It seems like he views him favorably. Both of them cultivate the path of the sword, so naturally, the sword sovereign will appreciate him. Besides, in this world, perhaps he is the only one that is most eager for Lu Chao Ji's growth. Why? Why? Because he has no match. If Lu Chao Ji's power matures, he will have a fighting partner who he can duel with relish. But aren't there three of you? We were, but not anymore. He's half a step away from stepping into the ninth rank and is the strongest in the world. Half a step away from the ninth rank, the very first in Tianqian for 10,000 years. The strongest in the current era. The records of demonic beasts, this book states that even for an ancient Dragonian beast, it will have the abilities of a seventh rank and above. Ancient Dragonian beasts are indeed extremely strong, possessing such potent power despite being mere hatchlings. For humans to cultivate to the seventh rank, not only do they have to spend a hundred years, but they have to be gifted as well. HM? The aura is receding, his rank seems to have stabilized. Phew, I have stabilized my rank. This is damn awesome. Massive EXP earnings. A whole collection of altar orbs. And I even have one more clue about the Emperor Qing's heart waiting for me to see. Woohoo, I have really taken off this time. Chao Ge, if you have any more questions, feel free to ask me. I do have some questions about something. Marshal Uncle, is it possible for me to see your sword domain? The sword domain of the world's best swordsman, will he demonstrate it this easily? Sure. Please enlighten me, Marshal Uncle. There is no need to be enlightened, just looking is enough, perhaps it might be beneficial to you. But even if you gain nothing from that, it doesn't really matter. When I demonstrated my sword domain to you, you, I said the same words as well. Sword Sovereign, why doesn't it matter whether I gleaned anything from it? Doesn't this mean that I'm not qualified enough? Because what I will show is merely my path of cultivation. You have to walk your own path. My own path of cultivation? Walking the path trodden by your master will be easy and convenient. It will be like me leading the way with lantern fire while you follow my footsteps. You will never lose your way. However, in the end, you will never be able to walk in front of me and surpass your master. Furthermore, if I happen to go astray and the lantern fire is extinguished, you will be lost, with nowhere to go. But if you found your own path and trudged it all the way, when you are tired and you stop for a rest, you can take a look at your master from afar, walking his own illuminated path, giving you some inspiration. At that time, I will be even happier than when you were walking behind me. Because that is a path that belongs to you. So, Chao Ge, what will be your reply? Yes. Only one word, how interesting, seems like you have already determined your own path. In that case, watch carefully. This visual effect is so lavish too. Sword Sovereign Sword Domain can't be seen by the naked eye. I will use Sword Heart to see. Such a powerful domain, to convert everything into a blade, this is making a sword out of heaven and earth. As long as you are within this sword domain, there is no escape. You have no choice but to use all your power to fight him to the end. As expected from the best swordsmen of the current era. Chao Ge, take a look. This is my sword. Huh? After it intertwined with my sword domain, my sword domain became capable of changing the forms of objects. Look. The sword of the world's number one swordsman is just a piece of black bamboo leaf. Tens of thousands of swords made out of everything can also become a sword of one. One sword made out of everything, this is the world's number one sword cultivator. HM? Why did you come out? 
Calm down, it's the sword sovereign demonstrating. Sword cultivation, the sword is human, and the human is the sword. For the sword to be bold enough to come out of the sheath and face my sword domain, it can be seen that the sword owner's character is tenacious and extraordinary. As expected of the man who even my junior brother couldn't be the primary master of and had to settle as a one-time master. Don't be anxious, don't be anxious. One day in the near future, I will face that sword of heaven and earth at the top. But, is old man G really sure that there is only a fine line of difference between him and his senior brother? G Chang Kong, this personal experience really feels like he isn't just a little bit worse, but a hundred million times worse. HM? What's going on? Why did I start to feel a little dizzy? Chao Ge, disperse your divine consciousness. You'd looked at my sword domain for too long. The burden is too much. Yes. This is the sword domain of an eighth rank. Just looking at it is enough to deplete my spiritual energy. How ridiculous. You've already seen my sword domain. No doubt you've already understood it. There are no benefits to being too greedy. If I let him see it longer, it will hurt his divine consciousness. If I ruin this child, I will never be able to forgive myself. After all, perhaps my only opponent in this life is him. Are you feeling better? I'm feeling much better. Sword Sovereign Sword Domain lives up to its reputation. What? You know how to flatter others as well. It's not that. It's just that with such a massive mountain like you, climbing it will be much more interesting. This child, his ambition is loftier than the skies. Oh right, Marshal Uncle, what is the level of your sword intent? When I was viewing the sword domain, the sword intent was too powerful, I couldn't even see through it. The analysis of that broken system was full of? Question marks. I'm now at the eighth level, but Ancestral Master was at the ninth. The ninth level, was the tenth level achieved before? I clearly remember that his swordsmanship talent's limit was at the 10th, which Yu Yu has, for example. It would make sense for the limits of sword intent, which follows the same system of growth as swordsmanship talent, to be 10 as well. The pinnacle of swordsmanship in all Tian Qian is still the ancestral master, and he had only achieved up to the 9th level, so the limit of swordsmanship is only at the 9th level. If there is someone that reached the 10th level, then naturally there will be the 10th level as well. Interesting, very interesting. A realm that not even the ancient masters had achieved, walking this kind of path is what makes it meaningful. You've earned Sword Sect Sword Sovereign's effective guidance. Would you like to retrieve your reward? It's finally here. I thought you would never come. Retrieve. You've received Sword Intent 50% discount upgrade voucher asterisk 1. Usage only limited to its current level, you've received Supernatural Ability 50% Discount Upgrade Voucher Asterisk 1. Usage only limited to its current level. Two 50% Discount Vouchers. One voucher is already enough to save 16 million EXP, two of them would save 32 million EXP. As expected of the guidance from the world's current number one swordsman. Just once is enough to reward me with twice of what I got from old man G. Swordsmanship talent, 5 upgradable, limit is 10, sword intent, 5, note, to continue upgrading, leveling up swordsmanship talent is required, natal supernatural ability sword heart, 5, note, to continue upgrading, leveling up swordsmanship talent is required. It's a shame that my swordsmanship right now is only at 5. I can't level up even if I want to. I have to quickly expand the sect. I can't let the sect hamper my growth. I will have to give them a good kick in the butt to spur them on. Marshal Uncle, I will be returning to the sect now. Are you still coming with me? I will go back right now to whip them into shape. Yes, I am. I want to go back to MO sect again to verify something. Again? He used the word again. Don't tell me, he already went to M.O. Sect once before? What a good guy. Could it be that M.O. Dong Fong's breakthrough has something to do with the Sword Sovereign? In the days that I was gone, how much did M.O. Sect change? I am really, really anticipating it. Then we shall move together again. All right. M.O. Sect, Dan Ching Mountain, unsuccessful. What's going on? 
Why can't this waste plate open up the protection array? I'm sure that this is how you use this. Wait, don't tell me that because little Lizzie sees I haven't returned for so long, she actually went and changed the locks protection on the door array of our home? Fine, fine, fine. So this is how little Lizzie wants to play. There's a smell, the smell of a homemaker, and it's very pungent. Since I can't open the door, I will just break it open. I am the master of this sect. I refuse to believe I can't enter this door. HM? What's going on? Why does it feel like I'm hitting something soft? And this soft thing is sucking me like crazy. It clearly wants to suck me dry. Why does this thing look so weird? I feel like even if Zhao Zhichi was here, he wouldn't be able to destroy this protective array. So that's how you treat your brother that hasn't come back for a long time. You are disrespecting your seniors. When I get back, I must reestablish my sibling's superiority. What's wrong? You don't have the wooden plate to enter this array? You don't have it too? My Marshall Jr. brother said that I don't come often anyways, so having a wooden plate is like hogging a toilet when I don't need to take a dump. Cough, cough, I really don't have one. Hogging a toilet and not take a shit? Hee hee, Marshall Uncle must be joking. When we get back to the mountain, I will let Little Easy give you two of them. That would naturally be good. In that case, quickly open the protective array and let us enter first. There's no rush. Since I haven't returned for so long, why don't Marshall Uncle and I walk around M.O. Sect and take a look at the development of the Outer Disciples? How about it? Shit, shit. If the world's number one, Sword Sovereign, finds out that I don't have the house keys, wouldn't I look like a joke in front of him? To be laughed at by the Sword Sovereign, even the smallest shame will become a huge embarrassment. That's good as well. Let's take a look. Sure. This area is the outskirts of my M.O. sect, and those who are picking fruits, lazing around, planting crops, and basking in the sun are our errand-running disciples. From what I see, M.O. sect's flourishing population is not worse than my sword sect. Whoa! So beautiful! As expected of Ari. Awesome, awesome! Slender like a swallow with beautiful curves, that is clearly describing you. This handmade modification is truly unbelievable. I will definitely watch your live stream tonight. Kill me, sister. I specifically hired a fashion designer to design this outfit based on M.O. Sex uniform. It took me a whole 10 days of effort to fully create it here. Tianqian World's beautiful aesthetics of the ancient feudal era took a massive hit. Cough, cough. Your M.O. Sex errand running disciples are quite something else. That's of course, they are all like me. Cough, cough. Let's take a look elsewhere. Sure. Quick. Stop. This is the frame. Stop. Zoom in. It's this smile. Look at me, guys. How is it? Does my smile look like the sect leaders? Not like that. You have to crook it a bit like mine. He he he. If I learn how to smile like this, do I still need to be scared of not finding a girlfriend? What kind of cultivation are they doing? They are just poorly pretending to be me. There's no need to see any further. H.M., why is he there? Is there anything wrong? This is the mist formation set up to test newly entered disciples. He is M.O. Sex direct disciple. Why is he here? Maybe there is more to this disciple. This disciple is indeed special. Sometimes his luck is incredibly good. Other times his luck is ridiculously terrible. Just drinking cold water on normal days could even endanger his life. But to let him be at such a perilous place is too dangerous. You see, he is facing danger right now. This happened again. How is this possible? Perhaps his luck has changed. System, analyze. Isn't his value of luck fixed? I remember it was, question mark. Level, 31, third rank, first heavenly layer, Mong Fong, human, health points, 4810 slash 4810, spiritual energy, 2850 slash 3845, core bone, 3, can be leveled up, capped at 10, swordsmanship talent, 
3, can be leveled up, capped at 10, luck, 10, permanently fixed, cannot be leveled up, charm, 1, overall evaluation, child of luck that defies heaven. This kid, how did his luck become 10? And he is also a child of luck that defies heaven? His luck changed from question mark to 10. This is like transforming from a human into a koi. This young man bears massive luck, but it wasn't completely fused into him, which resulted in the occasional backlash. When I was in MOSEC previously, he was at the cusp of fusing with his luck. Now that it's all fully absorbed, the backlashes won't happen again. Something major like this actually happened when this venerable one wasn't at home. This kid would be very useful in the future. I shall call you the superb human tool. Below are the wild imaginations of Lu Chao Ge. By letting the child of luck lead the exploration for this heaven's chosen one. All dangers can be avoided. The correct path will be chosen at every juncture. All treasure chests open will be the right one. Clearing secret realms will be as easy as drinking water. Once I got the clue to the cheat of Emperor Qing, Mo Dong Fong would be my best companion. Since the sect leader and sword sovereign are back, please come in. It's Little Easy's voice, but why does it sound so emotionless? After you, Marshal Uncle. All right. What's wrong? Everything's fine. Welcome back to the sect, sect leader. She's calling me, S sect leader? Lu Donley greets Marshal Uncle. Ignoring the fact that she didn't call me brother, she didn't even give me a glance. This behavior is like a resentful woman waiting alone in an empty room while the man plays around outside. Welcome back, sect leader and martial uncle. Welcome back, sect leader and martial uncle. Hmm? Everyone is normal, except for little Lizzie. This girl's charm skills has increased again. The sect leader is back? Where's the sect leader? Brother sect leader, look at me. Do you like the modifications, master sect leader? The sect leader is finally back. Our MO sect is going to take flight again. Damn, finally back to the sect. I painstakingly broke through 10,000 troubles just to join the MO sect for him, but ever since I joined the sect, he hasn't been home a single day. Lu Chao Ge is back. My youth is coming back. I can't just say nothing to little Lizzy forever. Right? I have to find a topic. That's right. I want to test whether M.O. Dong Fong, this child of luck, is the real deal. Elder Dong Li, release M.O. Dong Fong from the mist formation. Elder Dong Li? As you wish, sect leader. Master finally let me out. What an interesting pair of siblings. I have to go greet my junior brother for a while. Who is my senior brother to make this junior brother greet you personally? After a long time away, I'm finally back home. Does anyone miss me? A person who exhibits no presence, yes. I really miss the food that the sect leader made. A person who exhibits honesty. I do. A person who exhibits cute, sexy charm. I did miss Marshall Uncle sect leader. A person who exhibits sincerity. Humph. A person who exhibits the aura of a resentful woman. Elder Dongli, what are you humphing for? Nothing. A one-word reply, this damn brat. Anyways, you, come spar with me in a while. Me? Yes, you, this venerable one wants to see how much you've improved in this time to test whether his cultivation growth is real or fake, and to test whether he really is a child of luck. Marshal Uncle Sect Leader, I. No need for more words. You better have the mindset of wanting to kill me. If not, I can't guarantee what will happen next. Marshal Uncle Sect Leader, you are mistaken. I made some improvements recently and was just about to find you for advice. Not bad, that's a bit like me. This venerable one shall enlighten you seriously. M.O. Sex Marshal Arena Master, third junior brother won't get hurt, will he? Sect leader looks very serious. I don't know, but little M.O. carries around massive luck. Perhaps it will exceed our expectations. Sect leader, pardon my disrespect. 
Be as disrespectful as you like. I want to see just how disrespectful you can get. In that case, pardon my offense. Not bad, but there's still room for improvement. Try to match this venerable one's tempo. Yes. It seems like he has reached his limits, to be able to persist on despite having your spiritual energy dried up, as expected of my M.O. sex disciple. It's time to test whether his luck will protect him from danger. Ah. Brother. Go easy on him. My sword, actually, twisted away. Sect leader did go easy on him at the end. I was really worried for a second. Phew. That strike just now, senior brother wasn't the one that twisted his sword away. I was targeting a strand of his hair with my strike just now. I pushed his sword away first, then. BU1 seems to have been obstructed by something, and I couldn't slice off that strand of hair. And many thanks to sect leader for your enlightenment. This is. This is the luck that protects him. I see, to be accepted into M.O. sect must be due to his overwhelming luck. Lu Chao G.E. confidently and calmly reached such a conclusion. You were really great. That was seriously not bad. Ha ha ha. What happened? An enemy ambush? You misguided him. You misguided him. Chao G.E. quickly explained everything to my junior brother. Me? Yes, you. Quickly tell him that I did not even become your one-time master. Senior brother, are you still trying to deny it? You showed him your sword domain. Doesn't this mean that you become his one-time master? You've taught a junior irresponsibly. I have to teach you a good lesson today. Ah, this, it was all because of this? Marshal Uncle G is mistaken. The sword sovereign really didn't become my one-time master. Then how do you explain seeing his sword domain? I didn't study the sword sovereign's sword domain, but merely made an exchange with him. I demonstrated my sword domain to him, and Marshal Uncle Sword Sovereign demonstrated his to me. Brother, you awakened your domain. Little Li Zi, your big brother is now a great cultivator too. Isn't having a sword domain a normal thing? You finally stepped into the fifth rank too. That's great. Huh? What do you mean by finally? Don't tell me you are still suppressing your rank to wait for me. What exactly is your rank right now? I have to get a clear answer sooner than later. Is that really true? It's true, it's true, it's definitely true. Furthermore, upon viewing Chao Ge's two domains, I benefited greatly as well. Humph. It's fine as long as you don't misguide a junior. With Chao Ge's distinguishing talent and my instruction, his future achievements will definitely. Wait, how many sword domains did you say he has? Two sword domains. Two sword domains? It's impossible for someone to own two sword domains. How in the world did you do it? It came naturally. Naturally, my ass. But I can't possibly tell you that I have a cheat, right? Good, good, good. Quickly demonstrated for us to see. The young lord actually has two sword domains, as expected of my young lord. Having no presence means having no mental activity. Sect leader is amazing. As expected of the sect leader. Although Xiao Qiu doesn't know what a sword domain is. In that case, please give me some guidance. Sword domains materialize. Sword domain human immortal. Sword domain slaughter. So beautiful. So cool. Such a strong killing intent. So powerful. Whoa. 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 This is brother's sword domains. T this, this is the ancestral master's sword domain, slaughter. My brother's sword domain is the sword sex ancestral master's sword domain? That red one is definitely the ancestral master's sword domain, slaughter. But how is it possible that there is someone in this world capable of condensing a sword domain identical to the ancestral master's? 
Senior brother, what is going on? Chao Ge isn't even our sword sex black bamboo forest's disciple. How could he? Junior brother, this is all natural. This old man is going to say something hard to understand again. Take another look at Chao Ge's sword domain, feel it, and you will be even more shocked. Chao Ge's sword domain, HM? That sword domain is quite sinister. My spiritual energy is being stolen. Mine too, mine as well, Xiao Qiu's spiritual energy is floating away. This venerable one, a bona fide eighth rank sword cultivator, is actually having my spiritual energy stolen by you. This sword domain that you have is even more bizarre than the ancestral master's slaughter. Junior brother, it's the same for your senior brother too. The amazing thing about this sword domain is that it ignores cultivation rank. You are you. I am me. Brother is becoming more and more powerful. In the future, I can live on this Danqing mountain for the rest of my life. Young Lord is becoming more and more mesmerizing. With sect leader carrying the sect, I can do whatever I want in the future. I want to eat Tom Hulus, and I want three sticks of them. Stop moving. This is the Qinglong River, where Lu Chao Ge is. Aren't you going to say anything? Every time the four of us chatted casually, you would always have the most words. Now that we meet face to face, I never thought that you wouldn't even let out a fart. Successor of the Netherworld, Mu Bai Lu, one of the four main characters in Tianqian, a chatterbox in reality, but spoke little in the wooden plate. Successor of the Arhut, Nana Wu, one of the four main characters, a chatterbox in the wooden plate, but a social recluse in reality. I'm going to ignore you and find something to eat. What an adorable rabbit. How cute. It would be a waste to not roast it. Go. Domain expansion. Bullseye. You big baldy, open your mouth and say remove fur. Then light a fire for me. If I weren't afraid of you going crazy from not speaking, I wouldn't have bothered letting you light the fire. Humph. Ignite. Your silent zen is so fun. I noticed that you are strangely nice, even though you don't eat meat, you don't stop others from doing so, a classic example of not imposing your morals upon others. Compared to some other asshole monks, this is so much better. Big Baldy, do you think, this Lu Chao Ge, is he back in M.O. sect? I thought you didn't even know how to shake your head. Since we are passing by Qing Long River, it would be a waste if we don't make a trip to the M.O. sect. After all, he is currently the hottest rising star in all of Tianqian world. You nodded. Are you trying to say that if you don't meet Lu Chao Ge, you would be disappointed too? It's settled then. Let's pay a visit to M.O. Sect on the way. You agree too, right? But the problem is, is he at M.O. Sect right now? Why not? You say Lu Chao Ge right now, and instantly bring him here. How about it? He he. That's right. If your Buddhist sect had this kind of ability, the whole world would have already been yours. Let's hit the road. I heard from rumors that this Lu Chao Ge is a one-of-a-kind attractive man in the world. There's even a famous saying, one glance at Chao Ge will ensnare your heart so much that you won't marry anyone else. I really can't wait. Ching Zhou the Endless Sea Little Yang's skin is so white and fair, his future wife will be so lucky. Take a look at this auntie's body, what do you think? Ha ha ha, don't tease him anymore, he is blushing red again. Ha ha ha. Who asked Little Yang to be born so good looking? 
Come on, let's go. We still have to sun dry the fish. I won't tease you anymore. Ha ha ha. Life in the fishing village is still so rustic yet peaceful. So heavy, speaking of which, I heard that martial uncle sect leader's attribute is the unprecedented power of water. Then if sect leader collects water, he could just do it like that. That's amazing. It's so easy. I arrived at the door without knowing, sure enough, the sect leader can give me special strength. Grandpa should be in the house, right? Grandpa's temper is really bad. It's over, he's in the front yard. This kid is cowering in fear again. He really lacks manliness. I must scold you viciously today. Hayes. Forget it, I'll let him off today. After you pour the water into the water tank, come over here, I have something to tell you. He actually didn't scold me today? That's a bit weird. And he has something to tell me as well? What does Grandpa want to tell me? Grandpa, all the water has been poured into the water vat. Kneel down, don't make me raise my head to look at you. I finished kneeling, Grandpa. What can he bear, with such small shoulders? My eyesight must have deteriorated from becoming old to have chosen him. Do you miss home? Miss home. I miss my master, and I miss my martial uncle. I also miss my martial brothers and sisters, and also miss the food that my martial uncle makes. If you miss them, then so be it. You don't even mention it on usual days. I miss home. Grandpa, I miss home. If you miss them, then go back. Go back home and take a look. Huh? What? You're not happy with me giving you a holiday? I'm happy. Your seal has been released. My cultivation is so much higher than before. Could it be that the reason Grandpa wants me to collect water constantly is also making me cultivate? Take this and leave right now. I feel more at ease without you here. Looking at you makes me annoyed. This is the first time Grandpa gave me straw sandals. It fits my feet well. It's so comfortable. Am I treating him with too bad of a temper these days? Grandpa, then, then I shall leave now? You aren't decisive when doing things at all. Your sword in the future will be soft like you. Quickly scram, just looking at you is making me annoyed. Then I shall take my leave. Go, go little guy. It's time for Grandpa to go too. Where is little Yam going? Eh, why aren't you carrying water pails today? Don't run so fast. If you fall, this auntie's heart would be hurt. I'm going home today. Going home? Isn't little Yang's home right here? Where is he going? No one should be able to see me from here. Long time no see. I'm going home. Even when going home, you only dare to use your flying tool when no one is looking at you. Who did you learn this from? Forget it. If he likes to do it, then so be it. A disabled man who has been weaving shoes for a lifetime. Master, my time is almost here. It's the ninth fluctuation. Old friend, there is still one strike left in us. Hey, you made me wait for far too long. According to the revelation by the Emperor Qing, if the Eye of Chaos made its ninth fluctuation in three years, it means that calamity is imminent. At best, it would be three years, but at worst, it's one year. A monster surge could happen again within the Eye of Chaos. The Eye of Chaos isolates itself from all living beings. If you are not ninth rank, you won't be able to approach it. With my rank, I could only reach here. As expected. I have to inform them. Everyone, come. Junior brother. What's wrong? Fuck. 
I must control myself in front of my disciple. Just now, did Ji Chang Kong want to swear? What is that jade sword? Why did Ji Chang Kong, one of the four divine swords, lose his composure? Senior brother, you go first. You are going to meet the three of them, right? Yes. Master, what happened? Both of you should know Luo Hashan, right? Yes, he is a senior, also part of the four divine swords like you. Just now, he sent a message. The crushed jade sword means that the Qing Zhou's Eye of Chaos, which he is watching over, has a massive problem. The Eye of Chaos? But I went to Bei Zhou's Eye of Chaos a while ago with the saint and from her expression, there doesn't seem to be any problems with it. What does the saint know? That's the grand saint we're talking about, as expected of someone who could even order the sword sovereign around. Brother seems to know something? What is the Eye of Chaos? No, strictly speaking, there's no point looking at the Eye of Chaos from the other three continents. Why? What in the world is the Eye of Chaos? Is no one going to explain it to me? Ching Zhou's Eye of Chaos is the main body. The other three are controlled by it. Is the problem this time serious? A nonchalant expression, whatever, I will just force myself to listen. The Shattered Jade Sword signals a looming calamity. Calamity? What calamity? The Ancient Calamity. I don't have the specifics, only old Luo who shattered the Jade Sword would know about it. But for him to inform senior brother, the problem is definitely not minor. A looming calamity is one that hasn't happened yet. Around how much time do we have? You ask me, but who am I supposed to ask? So there's something you don't know? Nonsense. I will know eventually. When my senior brother comes back, I will ask him. He wouldn't dare to hide it from me. Fine, as long as I have an approximation. This is really strange. The calamity is fated to occur. This is Tianxian World's greatest arc. No matter if it's King Hades' sword or resurgence of evil spirits, they are all nothing but appetizers to the heaven and earth calamity. But, it's too early. From the information I had at that time, the villains of the main plot missions did know about the heaven and earth calamity. Therefore, they used the soul jades at an opportune time to sow chaos. Regardless if it's King Hades, or Chen Chi, or upcoming new villains in the future, they are monsters that borrow death auras and spirits to strengthen their bodies. The Calamity is their greatest opportunity. But they all appeared early before me, and they were all killed by me. How strange, everything came early. The Heaven and Earth Calamity should have come later. It should only begin when the main plot progress of all four continents reaches 50% and above, but right now, the slowest continent hasn't even reached 10%. Could it be that this chosen one triggered a massive butterfly effect? Since the calamity is coming, shouldn't we make preparations? Since it's already here, we can't stop it. So we shall battle it. When have sword cultivators like us ever feared battles? Exactly. How annoying, there's not much time for me to prepare. Brother and master are unreliable. I need to further strengthen the protection array. Right now it can only kill a sixth rank, it's still too weak. From her expression, my sister is probably thinking of ways to strengthen the protection array. That thing is already so powerful that even I can't break it. Disciple of the Netherworld, Mu Bailu, Disciple of the Arhut, Nan Wu, has come to pay M.O. Sect a visit. Eh? Why have the two protagonists of the world come here? Ching Zhou to the Eye of Chaos. Seems like they are all here. Today I gathered all of you here for one problem. Please speak, senior. The great Tianqian calamity, should we inform the world? This is indeed serious. The judge of death, if everyone finds out, there will be pandemonium. This humble monk agrees, why create trouble when you can prevent it? The Arhut, the people of the earth, live in a fog of uncertainty. To awaken them from their stupor would be another form of suffering. What does the Sword Sovereign think? On the contrary, I believe that everyone should be informed of this. 
Seems like my views aren't in accordance with the sword sovereign today. Today's weather is so nice, I'm going to take a nap. W. What's going on? How did the weather change so fast? Ah, uh, everyone look up. Such bizarre weather. Fiery clouds. Thunder and lightning. Howling winds. Why did they all appear at once? Then it is settled. We shall tell the entire world. Understood. MHM. This humble monk will pass the word. These four people are old enough, and yet they discuss using their fists and kicks. Seriously, they aren't mature at all. How could I have the confidence to entrust the heavy burden of protecting Tianqian to all of you? Since it was decided to inform the entire world, that thing will be the most suitable. Found it. This Wanming Bell is forged by the First Sword Sovereign. All 300 sects in Qing Zhou possess such a bell. Calamity is approaching. My fellow cultivators, step forth if you are willing to fight. Those who wish to quell the calamity, raise your swords. Qing Zhou's Wanming Bell, it would only ring when there's a serious matter. Nine Tolls this is a cataclysm of the highest order. It could be a calamity that raises the entirety of Qing Zhou and even the whole world. Those who wish to quell the calamity, raise your swords. Those who wish to quell the calamity, raise your swords. What in the world is going on? What calamity? Those who wish to quell the calamity, raise your swords. Big Baldy. Someone came. Those who wish to quell the calamity, raise your swords. How, how could there be such a good-looking man in this world? Ching Zhou's M.O. sect raises their sword. He is M.O. sect's Lu Chao Ji. Amit Ba. Nine tolls of the bell, this is a massive calamity that will engulf the entire Tianqian world. Choosing to raise the sword represents quelling the calamity with your own flesh and blood, never relenting even until the last member of the sect falls. He didn't have an ounce of hesitation. I now understand why one glance at Lu Chao Ge will ensnare your heart. Slightly earlier, Ching Zhou Sword Sect Subordinate Sect, Moran Mountain, 38th among the Middle Hundred Sects, those who wish to quell the calamity raise our swords. Nine thunderous chimes, the Sword Sovereign is transmitting his words. After more than 10,000 years, this is the first. Mojian Mountain Sect Leader Sun Qijing, something massive is going to happen. Sect Leader, should we raise our sword? Once we raise our sword, it would be mean dedicating all of the sect's power, never relenting even in death. This is the same as destroying the sect. If we hide our heads in the sand, perhaps our Majin Mountain could preserve and continue the ways of the Tao. All of you be quiet. The nine chimes of Wanming Bell symbolizes a calamity. How will the other sects deal with it? Divine consciousness will they raise their swords, or Ching Zhou Mo sect raises their sword. He raised his sword, what a young face, he looks to be in his twenties. Since the youths are behaving like this, as an old fossil like myself, why am I hesitating? Marshall brothers and sisters, there's already someone who raised their sword in the Qing Long River region. Who is it? Doesn't he know the consequences of raising their sword? Everyone should have heard of this sect in recent days. It's M.O. Sect, Lu Chao Ji. M.O. Sect, Lu Chao Ge, the Lu Chao Ge who is said to be unparalleled within his rank. Lu Chao Ge painstakingly lifted M.O. Sect from the lowest of the lower hundred sects to the middle. Once you raise your sword, one wrong move and everything's destroyed. Marshall brothers and sisters, when I was young, do you all remember when the Wanming bell rang and I went down the mountain to eliminate the demonic cultivators? What are you saying, sect leader? How could we not remember? Look at this scar. Didn't I get it that year? Humph. 
If it wasn't for that demonic cultivator CAE, who seriously injured my divine consciousness, I believe my limit would be higher than now, and I would have probably broken through at least three more ranks. Hey, this wasn't what Senior Brother Chen said that year. You said that you will stand tall after defeat and soar through the heavens in the future. Don't mention that. My martial brothers and sisters. Are you all still willing to accompany your martial brother down the mountain to slay these monsters? Yes. Good. Ching Zhou Majin Mountain, raise their sword. Ching Zhou, Jinyang Sword Pool, number O of the Upper Hundred Sex. Who wishes to quell the calamity, raise your sword. We welcome the sect leader. We welcome the sect leader. Those who wish to quell the calamity, raise your sword. Inyang Sword Pool Sect Leader, Mu Ching, my Inyang Sword Pool Disciples, is there anyone who is unwilling to raise their swords? Inyang Sword Pool, the Doctrine of the Ancestral Master. Recite. Death to the monsters who plague the world. Death to sect members who plagues the world. Death to the evil cultivators who plagues the world. Ching Zhou Inyang Sword Pool, raise their sword. Three hundred sects raised their swords one after the other. This is the spirit of my Qing Zhou sword cultivators. Shishan sect needs the sword sovereign's call and will stand united against the calamity. Ghost Sword Valley needs the sword sovereign's call and will stand united against the calamity. In Yang Sword Pool heeds the sword sovereign's call and will stand united against the calamity. Qing Zhou's radiance, their permeating spirit. Such is the essence of the Qing Zhou sword. Look. Damn. 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 It's the start of a new storyline. Main plot mission started. Qing Zhou's calamity is about to begin. Hundreds of Qing Zhou's sects have raised their swords in unison and shall leap into the fray. So cool. Things like calamity will cause a lot of deaths. There's nothing to be afraid of. It would be over fast. If you don't become a hero after training the sword, then all the training would go to waste. That's right. Being a sword cultivator is to save the world. I don't know why, usually I view them as idiots, but today, I find them quite handsome. There's no need to count, all sword cultivators in Qing Zhou have raised their sword. It seems like the players at the side have been stirred up. No wonder when I was a player in the past, Every sword cultivator looked so proud and arrogant, so that's the case. Sword cultivators have their own pride deep in their bones. Brother, you are so reckless. Look, that is one of Ching Zhou's four divine swordsmen, Ji Chang Kong. He is actually an MO sect. Could it be that little Lizzy believes I made a mistake raising the sword? Brother did the right thing as expected of my disciple, to be able to differentiate right from wrong. Hold on. Disciple? That woman is Lu Chao Ji's younger sister? Lu Chao Ji's younger sister is actually a disciple of a divine swordsman. Speaking of which, do you understand what raising the sword represents? I saw that you looked so carefree and didn't even hesitate. No idea. The youth really know no limits. Why must the youth be aware of the limitations of their reach? Why must the youth be aware of the limitations of their reach? Ha ha ha. Well said. Why must the youth be aware of the limitations of their reach? Well said. Well said. You are my senior brother. Why must you care about those senseless gossips? That was a long, long time ago. I was young too at that time. Brother's personality, Sai. I have to work harder on my cultivation in order to protect my brother. Marshal Uncle G, actually, I've always had a question in mind. I don't know if it's the right time to ask. There's no need to be afraid, just ask. All right, why is it that although your rank and Marshal Uncle Sword Sovereigns aren't that far apart, there is such a massive difference in your appearances? This. Do you want to know too? 
Since both of you want to know, then I shall tell it. When senior brother and I were young, it was actually different from how it currently is. Senior brother, I won again. Junior brother is powerful. Why do you always admit defeat so easily? We are the sword sex strongest lineage, the black bamboo forest. Can you be serious for a bit? Fine, fine, fine. I will be serious next time. Junior brother won today. Damn it. There's not even an ounce of seriousness at all. Read, read, read. You only know how to read from day to night. You are a sword cultivator, not a scholar. From the potential of his core bone, this first disciple of mine is a once in 10,000 years genius, but why is his cultivation progressing so slowly? Sai, could it be that I judged wrongly? One Ming bell rang, the ordinary people down the mountain are facing a disaster they can't handle. They even came to the sword sect to ask for help. I want to take a look. Any disaster will be dealt with now that junior brother is handling it personally. Your senior brother will be waiting here for good news. You are coming with me. Junior brother, junior brother, listen to me. Your senior brother's cultivation is inferior to yours. I would only cause trouble for you. It just so happens that I love someone causing trouble for me. Go together. It can't always be Chang Kong who goes out. After all, you are my oldest disciple. Yes, master. Marshal Brother G. He has already learned to fly with his sword. How elegant. It looks like Senior Brother G has the potential to become the next sword sovereign. Sword sect disciple Li Suifong, I have no idea why the sword sovereign insists his oldest disciple is a genius from the heavens, and my eye senior brother Ji is clearly the true heavenly genius. Junior brother, wait for me. Master sword sovereign must have judged wrongly. You must quickly learn how to fly with your sword. I'm not waiting for you. Sword sect disciples Ning Ying, is that the genius that appears once in 10,000 years? Senior Brother G, you actually came personally. It's not only me, there's someone else. This is the letter for assistance? There's someone else, who? It first. Pant, Pant, Junior, Junior Brother, you really. Pant, Pant, don't wait for me at all, Pant, ah. Uh. Vicious demonic beasts appeared in Bayun Mountain and maimed many surrounding hunters. Without the ability to hunt, their lives became difficult and required our help. Pant, Pant, Bayun Mountain, that, that is such a faraway place. You, you can't expect me to run till there. Pant, ooh, Pant. Junior brother? Too, too fast. Slow down, slow down, junior brother. Be stable. We can't be slow. There are people waiting for us to get rid of the danger. Junior, junior brother. Let's switch positions. You stand at the front. I'm feeling a bit dizzy, and I seem to be afraid of heights. How can a sword cultivator be afraid of heights? If this gets out, everyone will laugh until their mouths drop. You better shut up. Yes. He actually shut up after I told him to, but his honest body is shaking so vigorously. I really don't know what to do with you. Junior brother? If, if you fall... Our black bamboo forest reputation will be ruined. You hold on tight. Bayun Mountain is just up ahead. Yes, junior brother. Ching Zhou, Bayun Mountain. The mountain terrain is bizarre. White clouds envelop the mountain perpetually, hence its name Bayun Mountain. Stop making those sounds. If you want to vomit, do it now when no one is watching. The two of you must be sword sect cultivators. We have waited here for a long time. Junior brother, I can't hold it any longer. Not now. There are people watching. This, this is? If you vomit, our black bamboo forest reputation will be completely destroyed. Mm -hmm. There's nothing wrong. Hurry up and explain the situation. 
Hey, are you really all right? I'm fine now. What the hell? Cultivator sirs, that is our Bayun Mountain. For generations, our Bayun village situated at the base of the mountain has been hunting the prey in the mountains to survive. But recently, a demonic beast suddenly appeared in the mountain. Not only did it eat all the prey, but the hunters we sent to suppress it also died or returned injured. Our Bayun village has always respected Bayun Mountain and never slaughtered its life unnecessarily. Now that this demonic beast appeared, the prey in the mountain had dwindled, and it's becoming harder for our village to survive. Don't be afraid, old sir. Now that we are here, we will definitely eliminate that monster. The two of you came from so far away. Why don't the both of you rest for a while in the village? No need. We will eliminate the problem right now. Be but. We are indeed tired. Let's go to the village for some tea. Senior brother? Good, good, good. Please follow me. Instead of getting rid of the problem first, we are now disturbing them by drinking tea. What is your brain thinking? Ringing the Wanming bell and requesting help to eliminate harm costs silvers or spiritual stones. Do you think? They are able to fork out silvers or spiritual stones. I didn't think that deeply. Good tea. These are just crude products from the mountain wilderness. It's really unfit for welcoming guests. The last time that Eugene Sect Cultivator came to eliminate the monster, he immediately turned away once he heard there were no spiritual stones or silvers. This time, these two are dressed so lavishly, and they are Sword Sect disciples too. I'm afraid they will also leave, Shu. Quiet. Senior brother was right. S. Sirs, how many silvers does it take to eliminate the monster? We understand that the monster is hard to eliminate. But, but, junior brother, you would be spending more effort. What do you say? This is enough. What, what does that mean? Old sir, what my junior brother meant is that this bowl of delicious tea is already enough. I, is he saying he doesn't want silvers? Will they leave without killing the monster? If that's the case, we really have no way to survive. Everyone listen well. I am Ji Chan Kong. We are the disciples of Sword Sex Black Bamboo Forest. If the disaster in this mountain is not eliminated, I shall write my surname in reverse. Just now, Junior Brother had the air of an ancient chivalrous hero. Don't flatter me so much. If the demonic beast in the mountain has a higher cultivation stage than us, I'll drag you away with me and escape. I will ask Master to come and kill the monster. Do you really have to force me to say it? Shut up. Then you aren't coming back anymore? Yes, yes. Your senior brother will shut up. Stop. The aura of a demonic beast. Over there. Monster. I found you. Senior brother, you stand behind. Its aura is only at the second rank of intermediate stage. It's no match for me. Three re-rank beginning stage. Yes. First rank unbroken. Humph. I will make you silent in the next moment. It's junior brother's strongest move. Junior brother. Be careful. All beings are equal. Damn it. It actually managed to dodge it. It's an inch away from being dead. Junior brother, hurry and stabilize your aura. It can't escape. We can track it using its blood trail. I know, shut up. Yes. Junior brother. The blood trail ends here. Seems like it definitely burrowed into this cave. Junior brother's analysis is very logical. This senior brother is impressed. Can you use your brain when praising me? The way you are praising me makes me look stupid. Hey, hey, hey. Don't be offended, junior brother. Let's go. To the cave. Yes, junior brother.
It's so dark, I can't see a thing. Junior brother, is it a little better now? When did you learn to do these kinds of tricks? I saw it in a book. I just happened to try it and managed to do it. Just happened to try it? To convert spiritual energy into flames and feed it consistently, even if it's me, this level of spiritual energy control is very difficult to do. Did this guy suddenly become enlightened? I will open a path for junior brother. But he hasn't even broken through to the first rank. There's not a single sign of him being enlightened. What a huge place. Why it doesn't look like a naturally formed cave. You're right. This is indeed not a naturally formed cave. Who's there? So it's you two who hurt my cute schwammer? You are quite daring. Senior brother, stand behind me. He is a demonic cultivator. And he's above third rank. Third rank, how does it compare to junior brother? Naturally, I'm better than him. Really? So you're a guy that loves to brag. Whether I'm bragging or not, you will know soon. All beings are equal. Not a bad move. Did it work? Pant, pant, senior brother, leave quickly. Didn't you say you were better than him? Of course my skills are better than his. I just didn't want you to see the gory sight and get scared. Regardless, hurry up and go. B, but. I told you to leave. Scram. Since both of us descended the mountain together, we should return together. Even if Junior Brother wants to scold me or hit me, my answer will remain the same. You. This time, I won't listen to Junior Brother. Hayes, I must have terrible luck to have a senior brother like you. Remember, I can use all beings are equal one last time. That is my limit. This last strike, if I don't manage to kill him, it will be all up to you. Yes. What a powerful slash, but what a shame, my center is stronger. A third rank, ninth heavenly layer demonic beast, we can't beat this guy in our current state. As said before, this is not a naturally formed cave, so. Now, there is no escape. Center, give them a taste of your power. Senior brother, dodge quickly. Senior brother. Junior brother, I'm sorry, your senior brother's rank is too low and can't dodge. I will freaking kill you. Your sword move was indeed impressive, hee <laughs> hee, but don't forget, this cave is mine. Demonic cultivator. Do you dare to fight me head on? What kind of skill is extinguishing the lights? A sneak attack. Bastard. Don't waste your energy. My center eyes have long adjusted to the dark. What a shame. You are going to be toyed to death by us he. Bastard. Cowardly trash. Your cultivation is clearly higher than mine, but you don't dare to take my strike. Scold me however you like after you are played to death. We shall have a good feast with your corpse. Junior brother, there's light now. This is bad. Schwammeritz. You dare to ambush me. Die. Schwammer. Senior brother. Stabilize the flames. Yes. I will kill both of you. And offer you two to my Schwammer. I have to destroy the mastermind. Junior brother. And you. Open your eyes. We are the disciples of the Black Bamboo Forest. Junior brother. Senior brother, you listen to me. I really have this one last slash left. Regardless of whether this slash would win, we have to find a way to escape. At least, at least you have to escape. Junior brother. After all, you are the once in a tens of thousand years genius that Master has personally appointed. If something were to happen to you, it would be hard for me to explain to Master. Junior brother is leaving future affairs to me. Don't tell me. There's only one chance. 
This will be my strongest slash. Die. All beings. Center. Use your strongest defense technique. Senior brother. Remember my words. All beings are equal, are equal. The target was actually the stone gate. They are trying to escape. Hugh. I can't muster a single ounce of strength. As long as senior brother escapes, master will definitely seek revenge for me. If that's the case, I can die with no regrets. Senior, brother. If we leave, we leave together. You. No matter what happens, I will never abandon junior brother. Even if you scold me, hit me, hate me, I will never abandon you. This is the duty of a senior brother. You idiot, you are clearly so weak. The cave entrance has been opened by junior brother. We can. Escape, right? Do you really think this kind of trick is impressive? Senior brother. Heh, neither of you will leave. Senior brother. Senior brother. Let me down quickly. I won't. I won't. I'm the senior brother. You're going to die soon. What are you still pretending for? Senior brother. How ugly. Senior brother. Center. Here, have this as a snack. We shall enjoy the main course later. You dare. Put him down now. Or else I will rip you into shreds. Not only do I dare, but I will let you watch him get eaten too. He he he. If only, if only I was like junior brother, training my swordsmanship, it wouldn't have ended like this. Stop. Stop. Junior brother, I'm sorry, your senior brother shouldn't have neglected his swordsmanship. Aya, you still like to swallow it whole. What's wrong? With your current condition, what can you even do? What's that? This is my knowledge of the Tao, this is my potential. This is my future. How can Tao knowledge be materialized? I'm going to kill you. Dis disappeared. Center. Return my senior brother to me. Senior brother, right now, I might be much older than you. Sword sect Black Bamboo Forest. He's still not out? He hasn't eaten or drank for the past seven days. I think he's afraid and traumatized by the demon cultivator. Look at me, aren't I still alive and jumping around? Right, if junior brother says that I'm scared, then I am scared. This aura... Junior brother, master, sorry to worry you both. Fourth rank, this kid, you broke through the fourth rank. Yes. From this day forth, I will dedicate myself to the sword. Marshal Uncle Sword Sovereign went from first rank to fourth rank in seven days. It wasn't seven days, it was one. That six days was just to recover his injuries. Marshal Uncle Sword Sovereign is indeed deserved to be called a genius that only appears once in 10,000 years. Yes, if he wasn't dedicated to the sword, he couldn't even break through the first rank, but if he was, then he would become the world number one. Then, Master, do you regret it? I really wanted to kill it. Thank you, Master, for your teaching. What did I teach? If a day comes when the calamity can't be avoided, I will act like master and never regret. 
Little Lizzy, ha ha ha. As expected of Ji Chakong's disciple. Then as your brother, I must draw my sword first before you. Sect Leader Lu, can we come in? I forgot about them. Come in. Many thanks to Sect Leader Lu. We greet Senior Ji. Judge of death or arhat or whatever, they are inferior to the disciple I teach. Sure enough, in the ways of teaching disciples, no one can compare to me Ji Chan Kong. Master is displaying a weird sense of superiority again. Your silent Zen is quite interesting. Little monk, why don't you open your mouth for this old man? Ha ha ha. Why did the two of you come to my MO sect? The both of us wanted to seek guidance from Tian Chuan's newest top star, but with the Qing Zhou calamity right now, it doesn't seem to be the right time. Sect Leader Lu, the current situation is more important. Seeing that the whole Qing Zhou raised their swords, is there anything we can help with? This situation won't only affect Qing Zhou. Not just Qing Zhou, that means it's a heaven and earth calamity. No need for such an expression, calamity is approaching, but that doesn't mean that it will come immediately. We still have time to prepare. As long as there's time to prepare and it's not a sudden occurrence, then there's a way. There's still time, so there's no need to hide anymore. From what I see, the both of you came to M.O. Sect for the same reason as that kid you used to challenge him to a duel, am I right? Why you saw through us? Do I even need to look? Even till now, I often find my senior brother for a duel. This was indeed our intention, but is it appropriate to seek guidance suddenly like this? This old man G is clearly fanning the flames. He obviously hasn't seen enough of my sword domain. However, since Tian Chuan's calamity is approaching, I shall become a catalyst. Yu Yu and Chan Qian have already been fired up. Their little growth engine is running at full speed. These two will become key protagonists in the future of Tian Qian world. It's the right time for them to receive a vicious beating. Since you're looking for guidance, it won't be inappropriate. In that case, please enlighten us, Sect Leader Lu. I will go first. No need to take turns, the two of you can go together. No need for additional trouble. Such powerful sword energy. System, analyze. Anwu successor Arhut level 53, Bailu successor of the judge of death level 51, one is level 53 and the other is level 51. Their abilities are nothing to look at. I shall give them a little shock. What a ridiculous way to release spiritual energy. Apart from looking impressive, there is no use at all. Brother is still not grounded at all. Guys look up. They are fighting again? It's two versus one. It's here, it's here. Our MO6 traditional skill of the arts. Sect leader is fighting against two opponents. This is the classic show of demolishing the world's protagonist. This time, it's against two experts at fifth rank and above. Although I know that the sect leader will definitely win, I still want to see how he will win. Since sect leader Lu insists on a two against one, please excuse us. I recommend that both of you be serious from the start, if not, both of you will lose very quickly. Sect Leader Lu, your reputation might be resounding, but don't. Don't look down on others? I wasn't looking down on the both of you, I'm merely stating a fact. T2 Domains W what is that? They are like stands. N no. Is that a summoning technique? I saw it before on the forums, that is the domain you awaken when you reach level 51. But the forums clearly state that each person can only have one domain. But why does our sect leader have two? Could it be that the sect leader has a cheat? No, it means that he is the heaven's chosen one. Deserving of being a main character. His domain is very sinister. It's draining away my spiritual energy. Monk. He's not an ordinary opponent. Don't hold back. I will attack first. Mubailu's domain comes with a sure hit effect. This arrow barrage isn't an attack, but tools that can help me accumulate my slaughter buff. 
Sure he'd affect. Come. Sword of life accumulation has increased damage by 13%. That lady's domain seems to have the power to lock on to auras. That girl's domain is not bad. Little Lizzy, your domain. Master can't ask that. According to Chapter 3, Article 13, Paragraph 23 of the Contract. This, I forgot about the rules she set when I first took her in as a disciple. Then Master will not ask anymore. I don't even know the domain of my own disciple. What is this? If, if there's an opportunity in the future, I will definitely let Master see. Remember your words. You can't take them back. Sword of Life Accumulation has increased damage by 50%. Full stack, sort of life has finished stacking. What's going on? Usually people would be getting more and more exhausted blocking my flying arrows, but he is getting stronger as the fight goes on. Is it the ability of his other domain? My spiritual energy is continuously being drawn away. I can't win in a battle of attrition. Hey, are you going to continue shooting? Humph. I'm still able to shoot many more. Take that. Your actions are slow. It's my turn to act now. It's over. This amount of spiritual energy is so little to absorb. Domain. He's going to say domain shatter. Genius. Even if it breaks Lu Chao Ge's domain for only an instant, we will have the time to launch a counterattack. Shut up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. My mouth, I'm unable to speak. Interesting, interesting. Master, what's going on with that monk? He looks like you wanted to say something. That little monk cultivates the Buddhist sect's divine technique silent Zen. On normal days he can't talk, but once he does, it will cause a resonance of heaven and earth. If he says ignite, a fire will burn. If he tells the wind to rise, heaven and earth will raise the winds. Then aren't his words absolute commands? It's something like that, but this divine technique is closely linked to personal cultivation rank. If he's not careful, his body will die and his Tao will be gone. A potent power with a powerful backlash. No wonder brother used power of water to seal his mouth. Brother is only at the fifth rank. It's safer to lock up his lips. Brother finally understands the importance of acting seriously. Why is your mouth? Mm -hmm. Your silent zen is annoying, so I will deal with you first. The sword energy is stronger than before. Look! That monk got knocked down by our sect leader. Sure enough, sect leader's battles are worth watching. So awesome! Look over there! Don't be too happy yet. They are the world's protagonists after all. Is that a new skill? The power is completely different from before. Turns out that beautiful lady hit at one side to prepare a massive one. So it's that move, in the plot from my previous life, that was a very famous scene. Cosmetics ready to use cosmetics, steamed buns. Fresh steamed buns straight from the fire. Don't miss this when you pass by there are new and tender young men and women available today. Tom Hulu sweet and sour Tom Hulu over here mom. I want to eat a Tom Hulu. W what is that? So, so strange, such an oppressive feeling. It's a demonic beast swarm. Help. Someone save me. Run. Run. Hurry. It's a cultivator. We're saved. Thank you, Master Cultivator, for saving us. Once this move is used, arrows will continuously appear without needing to pull the bow until the target is destroyed. To the archer, it is like getting a Gatling gun with infinite bullets. One person wiping out an entire wave of monsters. Today, I shall test its power. Look out. Look. The arrows of this move are like locusts. 
it's even more ridiculous than before. The key part of this is that the arrows are generating nonstop. What the hell? That young lady in the red dress is literally firing a Gatling gun. Can the sect leader fend off against such an aggressive attack? It's still good. It's still good. Her rank is still not enough to break through my protection array. This move is quite convenient during a battle. Can that move win against him? I can't just stand behind and watch. How are you going to deal with this move? As long I have spiritual energy, the arrows will never stop. Sword, come. Go. Power of heaven and earth. Woohoo. I told you, our sect leader isn't that simple. He went big with this wave. So cool. Sword, come. Is there anything more cool than this? Why does his power of heaven and earth seem to have no end? My spiritual energy is going to run out soon. It's over. Great monk. Buy me some time to recover my spiritual energy. That big baldy came back. Congratulations. The proficiency of your skill slowed sound has increased to great completion and is able to unlock slowed sound final form. Do you wish to spend 1 million EXP to unlock? Huh? What a great technique. How interesting. So this skill has a hidden technique. Unlock. Unlock. Slowed sound final form unlocked. 1 million EXP has been spent. This is the perfect time to test its power. So this is the final form. The final form requires the execution of preliminary moves. Is Lu Chao GE launching an even stronger attack? I can't just wait here and do nothing. I have to use that move. Great Buddha Materialization it's the Buddhist sect's strongest defensive technique. Great Buddha materialization. The Buddhist sect's strongest defensive technique, it doesn't feel that strong to me. Naturally, you have to see the rank as well. If this was used by the Buddhist sect's arhat, I'm afraid even I, even my senior brother won't be able to break his defense. It's that strong? In the four great sacred lands of Tianqian, the sword sect focuses sharpness, the Chun Chiu on power, the judge of death on cunning, and the Buddhist sect on defense. Sword sect, Chun Chiu mountain, judge of death. Buddhist sect, the Buddhist sect is the most proficient at defending, so naturally its defense is the strongest. But this move of Chao Ji seems to be extraordinary as well. The casting movements of this skill are so long, if it isn't activated during battle, it would feel quite awkward. Is this the final move? The monk above seems to have used his ultimate. That defense is very powerful, even the sect leader's sword reign can't break it. What is the sect leader doing with that sword dance? Sect Master isn't doing a sword dance, his actions seem to be charging for an ultimate move. What the hell? A dragon. What the hell? It really is an ultimate move. This move is the most impressive move I've seen from the sect leader so far. Quickly record it. Ignite the forums. This is the priority privilege of being MO Sect Disciples. This scene is so explosive, those of you watching online would never experience this feeling. What is that sequence of moves? It's not even finished and yet there's such a suppressive sensation. Hugh, I'm finally done with the corrections. What's the situation now? W what is that thing? No matter what, you have to tank that move. Big Monk. It finally materialized. The casting movements of this move is so long, it's ridiculous. Let's see if I can break this bald guy's turtle shell. Sect leader will definitely not lose. Brother. Umph. It's over. 
Both of you, the victor has been decided. This is the end. We completely lost against him. I'm unwilling. Sect Leader Lu, can I ask one more thing? Go ahead. During the duel just now, did Sect Leader Lu hold back? Of course. Sure enough, he didn't use his full strength. Tianchi and Calamity, the two of you are quite gifted. Perhaps one day, we will meet each other again at the peak. This way, they're going to be fired up. As expected of me, the real child of the world, the advisor's Chao Ji. So that's how he evaluated the both of us. Seems like in the past, I've been too lax. Thank you, Sect Leader Lu, for your guidance. We will take our leave. It's time to cultivate with everything I've got. Sect Leader won again. So handsome. Sect Leader, look at me. I really like you. Sect Leader, darling. I want to bear your child. Chow Ge, Chow Ge, I love you like how rats love rice. Rejoice, this is all what this venerable one deserves. Not bad, not bad. Your sword domain slaughter won't tarnish the reputation of the ancestors of the Black Bamboo Forest. Little Lizzy, don't slack off on your cultivation. This master will be returning back to his sect now. The sword sect is going to convene a grand meeting of sects again. Yes, master. How was it? How did your brother perform just now? Brother was too flashy. It's totally not practical at all. I'm going to become the world's number one anyways. Why do I need to be practical? Speaking of which, I taught them a lesson because I want to ignite their potential. I was thinking for the world, you are too narrow-minded. Nonsense, what you're doing is too dangerous. Here. Take this. Didn't I say it before, this is the puppet of life and death, given to you by your master, I can't accept this. Marshal Uncle Sword Sovereign gave me another one, now that I've an extra one, I can give it to you. Take it. If brother is gone, I can't bear to live on anyways. You're always keeping such a high profile, you need it even more than me. Little Lizzie. I don't want to hear any mushy words. I'm going off to settle some sex stuff now. Little Lizzie, on the surface she looks like she doesn't want to see her brother, but in fact, she's worried about me. But you don't have to worry, your brother won't die that easily. I am the savior of this great land after all. Since we've got to face the calamity, we have to develop players who can not only revive infinitely, but also defy logic and upgrade themselves crazily first. Players who aren't afraid of death and whose eyes light up when they see demonic beasts will definitely be the fiercest and most powerful ones when the calamity strikes. Luo Bing I'm here, Sect Leader Lu. I have something I want to announce to all the Outer Disciples. Please state your command, Sect Leader. It's time to stir up this group of attention-seeking players for a bit. M.O. Sect Outer Disciples Settlement Work hard and get rich. I have to work hard and get rich in the game too. This is too exciting, even washing clothes feels so real. Can all of you be serious? We are magnificent, glorious, and righteous sword cultivators. Humph, I'm about to reach level 20 and won't be at the same level as you trashes anymore, Lin Hua Gong level 19. Don't think that you are the only person at level 19, I am one too. Lin Ari level 19. Silence. Senior Sister Luo Bing. Senior Sister Luo Bing is like an elder representing the sect. Did she come because a new sect event is going to be triggered? Could it be that the sect leader is finally thinking of accepting me? As per the command of the sect leader, from this day forth, every player shall be tested on their cultivation. If you manage to step into the third rank in one month, you will be rewarded with his personal sword techniques. Sec Mission, M.O. Sec Sec Leader's Personal Test, Mission Content, Level Up to Level 30 in One Month. Mission Reward, Purple Grade Skill Book. Good Heavens! This is a jackpot! A Purple Grade Skill Book. Brothers! We endured so much for it! Sec Leader's Personal Sword Technique. Are there finally going to be real rewards? 
If you manage to break through over the third rank in two months, you will be additionally rewarded with one weapon personally forged by the sect leader, limited to three people. Sect Mission MO Sect Sect Leader's Personal Test Mission Content Level up to level 31 in one month. Mission Reward MO Sect Weapon Limited L Limited Weapon Limited Weapon Did you guys see those two words? So there's an even bigger reward after the first one. But only three people can receive the weapon personally forged by the sect leader. I'm going to cultivate now. Kill monsters. Killing monsters gives more EXP. I don't care anymore. I will do whatever gives me more EXP. I will give my all for the sake of sect leader lose limited weapon. Everything went according to what sect leader predicted. Everyone was every excited. All right, that's all for now. You're dismissed. Does the young lord want me to serve tea? No response. It has been a long time since I was close to the young lord. No matter what, today I must. Aya. Pure desire technique. Pretend to fall down and mess up clothes to look alluring. Forget it. You can stay and help me massage my shoulders. I happen to have something big I have to do later. Yes, young lord. Is the pressure right? Young lord. Yes. As long as I can help young lord relieve some of his pressure, I am satisfied. Whoa, the system even has such a function. You are going to great lengths to scam away my EXP. Yellow grade weapon forging book. Blue grade weapon forging book. Purple Grade Weapon Forging Book Orange Grade Weapon Forging Book can be exchanged using EXP Yellow Grade Weapon Forging Book. Those players should be happy enough if I choose the yellow one. So many, I will just choose one that looks ostentatious. Paper Crane, this doesn't seem too bad. Young Lord, will you be cooking today? Why did you suddenly ask about that? Junior Sister Xiaoqiu asked me to ask you, she said, that she misses the food you cook. I will do it. Thank you, young lord. Her grip strength has suddenly increased. This girl is also looking forward to my cooking. It smells so good. Xiaoqiu can't wait anymore. The freshly stewed black carp soup is here. Let's eat. Speaking of which, there's another hungry one at the graveyard. It has been a while since I handed in my tasks. I shall go and visit it later. This brat still hasn't given up? Brother has already been taken by senior sister Jiang. Although having a sister-in-law is annoying, sister Jiang, I can accept her. After I finish visiting, I will let Hei Ting absorb the soul jades and test the orbs I created using human immortal at the same time. There is a high chance that Hei Ting is able to absorb them as long as you can suck. This master will fill you up. In the next Purple Moon Cult Altar, it will be an EXP farm for both of us Master and Disciple. Hey, <laughs> hey. Hey, Ting, after you finish washing, come find me in my bamboo hut. Master has something to tell you. Senior Brother, the washing water splashed onto my face. Brother, where are you going? Do you need me to come? No need. If you came and saw my drained state after having my blood essence drained out, where would your brother's pride go? Are you there? Knocking on a grave to ask if there's someone there is really a very weird scene. Usually one knock would be enough for her to come out. Why is she so quiet today? Could she be dead? Should I dig it up? Speaking of which, I haven't seen what she looked like before. What type of person would the person we worship be? I'm suddenly very curious. Let's do it. If she isn't dead and I dig the grave up suddenly, won't it be very awkward? It will be very awkward. Just the thought of it makes me want to dig out three bedrooms and a living room with my toes. I will use my blood essence to test first. In the past, as long as my blood essence is out, she will definitely appear. Ancestor, your most favorite blood essence is here. Do you want a taste? Woo, smack, smack. Only the sound of smacking lips, but she didn't fly out to eat. 
It seems that this time, her sleep is deeper than ever before. Since that's the case, I will come see you after a few days. What a delicious smell, but I can't move my body. It's so heavy. This world, some familiar smells are coming back. Why isn't Hei Ting here yet? Does washing dishes take so long? Who's there? Why is it you? Right now, not only can you conceal your aura, but your spiritual energy is completely hidden too. Even your master didn't discover you. Go in and find a place to sit. This kid, he has such ability even when he's not actively hiding his presence. If he does it consciously, wouldn't that be something? As expected of my disciple, let master give you a push. You absorbed so many soul jades last time. During the period when I wasn't here, did you feel any discomfort? Soul jades are objects of the evil King Hades. After all, I have to ask him just in case. This means that your body feels even better than before. Since that's the case, absorb all of them. Whoa! You must be flabbergasted. There's so much of them it's like they are free. My cultivation shows no signs of improvement and fully relies on master to brave dangers and find these things for me. There's so many of them too. I wonder how many risks and difficulties he experienced for me. Master's kindness can never be repaid. Have completely no idea that his disciple is creating his own fantasies. What is up with this kid? Master's kindness can never be repaid. Hey, your snot is coming out. There is no need to be so touched to this extent. Stop crying and calm your heart now. You still have to preserve energy to suck this entire box of soul jades dry tonight. Woo! Hei Ting's aura is increasing rapidly again. He's going to level up many times with this many soul jades. System notice due to your disciple Hei Ting's improvements, you received EXP as reward. System notice due to your disciple Hei Ting's improvements, you received EXP as reward. System notice due to your disciple Hei Ting's improvements, you received EXP as reward. Because of the existence of the Master Disciple System 1, I'm going to receive a big one too. HM? His Shadow. They're all staring in the same direction. They're all staring at me. It looks like Hei Ting's shadow is completely not concealing himself from me. This venerable one is merely here to protect and not to harm my disciple. There is no offense. As expected, they want a bigger space, because as Hei Ting's strength increases, they are able to spread to more places too. This also means Hei Ting's shadow is currently getting stronger. Ah, fourth rank great completion. His cultivation stopped at 4th rank great completion. The 5th rank is indeed a huge bottleneck. Even something at the level of the soul jade is not enough. Brother, not good. It's Donley's voice. What happened? Something happened outside the sect, eh? Let me see. So many lower level ghost monsters are rushing towards my Danqing Peak. It's Hei Ting. The aura that Hei Ting is releasing is luring these guys here. But this is a perfect timing. The sect suddenly released a leveling up mission, but the amount of wild monsters surrounding MO sect is too little. Castrate with one slice level 17, right now, even the flies in this area have all been killed. I love to dig the most level 16, you still say. I discovered that fly first just now, but you stole my kill. How shameless. Lin Huagan level 19. It belongs to whoever killed it first. I didn't steal your monster. I love to dig the most level 16. Lin Huagan level 19. You stole it. I saw it first. Wild monster. It's a wild monster. My EXP. The EXP is mine. I saw it first. It's mine. It belongs to whoever killed it first. M.O. Sex Disciples, hear my command. It's the sect leader's voice. 
What happened? For the sick mission revealed today, this venerable one has prepared a training for all of you. Go outside the sect and face the attacks. Training? Could it be, the sect leader prepared wild monsters for us personally? Whoa, sect leader seems to be even more handsome than before. Whatever, since sect leaders say that there's monsters outside the mountain, then there's definitely monsters outside. I will go first. You are right. Let's go. I am first. Humph. I will not fall behind too. This. This, this. It's living humans. It's the flesh and blood of living humans. Eat. 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 Blood. Want blood. Blood. It's wild monsters. We're rich. There's so many. I will farm them all even if I have to take leave tomorrow. Kill, kill, kill. How to say this, the moment both parties meet, both of their eyes flashed green, and for a second there is no telling which side is more frightening. So many small wild monsters, I don't even know how the sect leader did it. Who cares, the sect leader is awesome, sect leader is awesome. Lu Chao GE is awesome. Stand up, every one of you stand up. This is how the ghost monsters that managed to escape describe that day to their descendants. Those living humans at the foot of Danqing Peak are definitely not human. They are the real devils. No matter what you do, never get close to Danqing Peak. It's settled. Is it alright to just leave it to the outer disciples? What if a ghost king is hidden within the ghost monsters? They might be just outer disciples, but they are the outer disciples of my MO sect. Anyways, if there really is a ghost king, this venerable one will kill it with one slash. Brother's weird illness is back again. I shouldn't have asked so much. This is Hei Ting's aura. He broke through the fourth rank grade completion and stepped into the fifth rank. Nice, nice, nice. Hei Ting, this kid really broke through into the fifth rank. What a sinister feeling. But if it's brother, it should be fine, I think. Not bad, not bad. The weakest great sword cultivator in history is going to be born. But he has already broken into the fifth rank, so why? Is there not a single sign of a domain taking shape? The domain should be dependent on this shadow. Little Lee Z, go and check on the situation outside the sect. I'll stand guard here. I have to find a reason to lure Little Lee Z away first. Yes. The invasion of the ghost monsters, it's not enough to fully rely on the outer disciples, I have to personally take a look. Those outer disciples neglected their training and didn't receive any proper guidance, I'm afraid their injuries will be severe. This. To fight with a disciple of M.O. sect, hey, are you even worthy? Humph, I don't even need to unsheath my sword to kill you. Killing one ghost every ten steps, never leaving behind any remains for a thousand miles. These guys, why are they all learning weird stuff from my brother? There should be no one around. Come out. A disciple greeting. This shadow has its own consciousness. Interesting. Very interesting. Let me see. Just what kind of thing you are. This guy is a ghost king? Wait, a ghost king that could absorb soul jades and is sentient, could it be? That this guy is King Hades? It was mentioned previously that the ghosts in Tianqian world all come from the death aura and ghost aura of the dead. The more concentrated the death and ghost aura, the stronger the ghost formed. But ghosts have a unique trait. They don't possess any thoughts and rely on their killing instinct to act, killing both their own kind and others. But King Hades is different, he can think, and possesses individual thoughts. He is the only ghost in the world capable of this ability. And it clearly has the ability to form thoughts. Since there are so many doubts, why not just ask the shadow which has its own consciousness? But if he really is King Hades, then what should I do? 
the revival of King Hades, the Qingzhou Calamity, the current main plot line of Qingzhou is King Hades' sword, for the sake of the citizens of Qingzhou, killing it is the only way. But it's Ting's shadow, if killing it means killing Ting too. I have to kill my only disciple personally? What bullshit is this? I am the one and only heaven's chosen one in this world. If it's really King Hades, I will rip it out of Ting before destroying it completely. The heaven's chosen one never walks the path of pain. Are you King Hades? Your life depends on your answer. Are you trying to be cute? Or you don't understand what this venerable one is saying? I thought it gained consciousness, but I didn't expect it to be an idiot. Arg. It hit again. Looks like Hei Ting is waking up soon. Fifth rank great completion. This kid, he actually stepped into fifth rank great completion. A cultivation rank where many couldn't reach in their lifetime, he actually did it just by absorbing soul jades. Besides, Hei Ting does have some purification effects on the evil aura of the soul jades, those evil spirits devoured by the shadows, perhaps they are King Hades' ghost aura and death aura. This is clearly a human-sized ghost aura purifier. I have actually stepped into the fifth rank great completion and entered the realm of a great cultivator. This is something I wouldn't even dream about. All of this is all because of Master. Master's benevolence is heavier than mountains and oceans. Hey Ting will never disappoint Master. Rise, don't be too happy just yet. If Master wishes me to do something, Hey Ting will definitely pursue it to its end. Master still has something nice here. Let's see if you can use it. Come forward, and even greater happiness is right behind. So not being too happy just yet means that there's something even better behind. Stand there and don't move. Let Master sense for a bit. HM? Why didn't a hint panel pop out from the system? Is Hei Ting unable to absorb these? The system clearly hinted that there is a disciple in MO sect able to absorb these orbs before. Looks like you aren't suitable for them. Go back and stabilize your cultivation first. It's fortunate they weren't suited for me. If I take every good thing from Master for myself, my martial brothers and sisters will feel that Master is biased towards me. As the sect leader, Master has to treat everyone equally. I must never be too reliant on Master. From this day on, I will have to work hard in my cultivation and repay Master's kindness. Since Hei Ting couldn't use them, I will call each one of them here to try. I will go in accordance with their age. I shall call Luo Bing first. Young Lord, for a man and a woman to be in a room together so late at night. Did you not make any preparations? Are replying to Young Lord's words, Luo Bing is always ready. You seem so skilled posing in this position. Then you lie down here and don't move. I'm going to take something. Young Lord is actually going to use items? It's so exciting. I'm so nervous. How, how do you use them? You found a disciple that can absorb these items. Do you wish to execute action? Yes, no. So it really is Luo Bing. Not a single one of my MO6 disciples is simple. But what is it with Luo Bing? Why can she absorb the altar orbs? These orbs possess the strength of ancient demonic beasts. Why is young lord looking at me with such a gaze today? Is my pure desire technique finally working? Will something like this or that happen? Calm your heart. Take them. Eh? Young lord, aren't these orbs a little too big? It's, it's my first time after all. Stop your weird thoughts and calm your heart down. Don't think about anything and feel it thoroughly. Accept it and absorb it. You just have to close your eyes and leave the rest to me. AC accept it. Ab absorb it. I just need to close my eyes and leave the rest to young lord. Yes, yes, young lord, please. This girl is hopeless. Her mind is completely dirty. He, he took them. Is it coming? Ah. Those who know will see this as absorbing altar orbs, but those who don't will think that something weird penetrated her body. 
These things have the power of ancient demonic beasts, after all. In order to ensure Luo Bing's safety, I have to see what exactly they release in the direction of Luo Bing. They have all been converted to spiritual energy, cultivators' spiritual energy. Luo Bing has the ability to convert ancient demonic beast powers into her own spiritual energy. This, this is similar to demonic beasts devouring each other and strengthening their body. But Luo Bing is clearly a human, and the system didn't show any special hint. Furthermore, there's something even stranger. Luo Bing clearly absorbed so much, but her cultivation didn't improve one bit. Luo Bing has yet to break through the third rank. I refuse to believe that the power of these three ancient demonic beasts isn't able to break her through the third rank. Suck them. Suck them all till you are full. I refuse to believe. How is this possible? She sucked ten of them completely dry. That is the power of three ancient demonic beasts. Luo Bing's cultivation didn't improve at all. What exactly is going on? Could she be a bottomless pit? I have to get to the bottom of where all that spiritual energy went within her body. The power of the altar orbs and Luo Bing's spiritual energy are distinct and don't interfere with each other. This situation is just too bizarre. Which human in the world is able to contain two separate powers? That's like trying to get the taste of Coke and Sprite from a single bottle of Coke. It's utterly impossible. Could it be that the Coke bottle can squeeze in both Sprite and Coke without mixing the flavors? Young Lord, can I open my eyes now? You can. Do you feel unwell anywhere in your body? It's better to ask the condition of the person involved first. Replying to young master, Luo Bing's body right now feels extremely filled. It's as if it was filled to the very brim with something. I'm asking you seriously, do you feel unwell anywhere? If I have to say about any discomfort, Luo Bing does feel a little empty around here. Looks like you are alright, go back to your room and sleep, but if you really feel unwell, then inform me immediately. Yes, young lord. This small body is quite durable. It's just that I have no idea if she is able to use the power of the altar orbs, I have to find a way to find someone able to use the power of demonic beasts. Don't demonic cultivators have the power to command demonic beasts in their blood? I have to ask demonic cultivators about this. This is their specialty. Demonic cultivators, demonic cultivators, where can I find some cute demonic cultivators to play with? The next day. The sect leader will be here soon. Everyone relax and have some tea. Senior sister, Marshal Uncle sect leader convened a meeting so early in the morning. Is he going to say something big? I don't know either. Could it be related to me absorbing the spiritual energy from those orbs yesterday? No need to guess everyone. The heaven and earth calamity is imminent and this sect leader decided to do something for the civilians around Qinglong River first. Brother, what are you thinking of doing? You must not mess around. There are ghost monsters overflowing at the foot of Danqing Peak right now and the outer disciples are fighting them fiercely. Those things are inconsequential. This venerable one is going to patrol the Qinglong River to uproot all the demonic cultivators who are hiding there. This way, when I'm facing the calamity, the civilians won't have to worry about the demonic cultivators. Your words make sense, but it's still too risky for you to go alone. Why don't we rally the sects along Qinglong River and eliminate the demonic cultivators together? This venerable one has already stepped into the great cultivator realm. Do I still need help to kill the little demonic cultivators in Qinglong River? This venerable one is enough. Wow. Sect leader is so cool. Go ahead without any worries, sect leader. I, Xiao Qiu, am enough to protect M.O. sect. Who exactly is this kid's master? To learn the bad habits so easily, but not the good ones. For this patrol, Luo Bing and M.O. Dongfang will be accompanying this venerable one. Yes. It has been a long time since young master brought me down the mountain. He remembered me this time. I'm so happy. For the sect leader to bring me along to kill demonic cultivators, it must be because he recognizes my abilities. 
The reason I'm finding demonic cultivators in the first place is because Luo Bing was unable to use the power she absorbed from those orbs. And Imo Dongfang, the child of luck, is a natural human-sized guiding machine. This kid might be able to open some treasure chests along the way or something, earning me a wave of resources. Brother, why won't you bring me along? There are still many ghost monsters under the mountain, and there's so many outer disciples as well. You also have to strengthen the protection array of the sect, it's better for you to remain here. Besides, your brother will be at ease with you guarding the sect. Is, is that so? With me guarding the sect, brother can be at ease. Luo Bing, Imo Dongfang, follow me to patrol the mountain. Yes. Brother, come back soon. Run if you face something you can't handle. How weak am I in little Lizzie's heart? She even told me to run if I couldn't defeat it. Ridiculous. Utterly ridiculous. Marshal Uncle Sect Leader, since we're eliminating demonic cultivators, is there a specific destination? Little M.O., you will steer the flying boat. Just follow your guts. Ah. Me? Follow my guts? But I don't even know where the demonic cultivators are. Demonic cultivators, please come out. As expected, as long as little M.O. wills it, his luck will activate automatically. Capture her. Don't let her escape. Damn demonic cultivators. You hurt so many of our companions. You deserve to be punished. She even stole the green cloud crystal. That is a good ingredient to forge flying items. Sect leader, there's some people surrounding a demonic cultivator. MHM. As expected of you, the child of luck, the most useful human tool, M.O. Dongfang. Ah, all of you are nothing more than food to me. We, Gingjin sect, are also the subordinate sect of the sword sect. Aren't you afraid of the sword sovereign smiting you for causing trouble openly? Humph. Of the Lord Sword Sovereign, unparalleled in the world, I'm so afraid he. You went too far. Everyone, attack. Little turtle, spray them for me. Wah. Wah. Not good. This demonic cultivator has already stepped into the fourth realm. We aren't her match. Since all of you know that you're no match for me, become the food in our mouths obediently. Everyone, I'm afraid that today, we're going to die here. H.M.? Eh, why isn't the water crushing us? With this venerable one here, you can all step aside. It's M.O. Sex Lu Chao G.E. It's him. The most popular cultivator right now. It looks like he has stepped into the realm of a great cultivator. With him here, the demonic cultivator won't be able to escape. I've long heard that one glance at Chao G.E. will ensnare your heart. The rumors are indeed true. With that figure and flesh body, devouring him would be an excellent nourishment. Little turtle, take him down. Playing with water in front of this venerable one? They're just pitiful tricks in front of a master. Not good. Lu Chao Ge's ability to control water is beyond my little turtle. Protection. Young Master's power of heaven and earth has become stronger. Martial Uncle Sect Leader's power of water, no matter how many times I see it, it never ceases to amaze me. It's time to put an end to this trash. No, the water that Lu Chao Ge controls is completely different from Little Turtles. It oppresses the body and completely suffocates me. I'm definitely not his opponent. I must escape. No demonic cultivator can escape from this venerable one's palms. Why, why am I feeling such a sense of bliss when he is clearly pointing his blade at me? Sure enough, one glance at Chao Ge is enough to ensnare your heart. Many thanks to sect leader Lu for helping us subdue this demonic cultivator. We will do something about her after we bring her back to our sect. These guys are clearly trying to leech off me. No need. No need? No need? Sect leader Lu, what do you mean? 
No need to thank me. When this venerable one fights evil, it is always done alone without relying on others. What is Lu Chao Ge trying to say? We've surrounded this demonic cultivator for so long, and now he's trying to steal our battle spoils. The green cloud crystal that the demonic cultivator stole is still in the storage ring. I must not let Lu Chao Ge take her away. The resource in the storage ring is ours. Sect Leader Lu, I am of the same status as M.O. Sect Sect Leader. You should be the one calling me senior. We spent a massive amount of effort to surround this demonic cultivator. It's not right for you to steal her away, don't you think? If he didn't act just now, all of you would have been dead. Ha ha ha. You, we. But. So much nonsense. Wah. Grab hold of my hand. Damn it. Why is Lo Chao Ge like this? We must report this to the sword sect. Are we really going to report this to the sword sect? What's the point? That year, I witnessed with my own eyes the direct disciple of the sword sect, Chen Xiao, being ordered left and right by Lu Chao Ge. Hayes, that Lu Chao Ge must have someone supporting him on top. This method of binding, if only young master would use it on me one day. Could it be that the sir fancies me? Although I'm a demonic cultivator, I can start off anew. Could it be that she really caught the young lord's eyes? She is indeed quite big. Luo Bing, search her for all the storage rings and pouches. Yes. Don't, don't touch my body. You cultivators aren't good people at all. You've killed the demonic beast three-tailed gigantic turtle LV-43. You've been rewarded with 2.5 million EXP. You dog system, did you choose that number intentionally? Young lord, I finished searching her. She has a total of two storage rings. Please have a look. There is a green cloud crystal in one of the rings. While the other doesn't have anything of value, please return it to me. I beg you. The more she says that, the more curious I am, what exactly is inside this other ring? There must be something interesting in this ring. I will see what exactly is inside these two storage rings. No. Not bad. Green cloud crystals are indeed excellent materials to forge flying items. They are very suitable for the yellow grade paper crane I've just chosen. Since there are green cloud crystals inside this ring, then what is inside this other ring that made her beg me for it? What's this? Why is this filled to the brim? If, if I didn't know it was a female demonic cultivator's collection, I would have thought that it was a changing room in some supermarket. He went in, those are clothes that I've worn on my body. Sect leader, what is there inside the storage ring? There's nothing, it's just some clothes. That female demonic cultivator actually cares about this type of things, seeing as how they are all shameful products. Maybe she will give a breakthrough regarding Luo Bing's situation. Just kill me. You've already seen what's inside those rings. I see that you know shame as well. I need your help for a task. But if I help you, would you let me go? This venerable one doesn't discuss conditions. You will or not. Tell me. For the sake of that evil face. Demonic cultivators control demonic beasts, and their blood possesses the power of demonic beasts too. I'm very curious, how exactly do you cultivate? Could it be that the constitution of humans enables us to use the power of demonic beasts? Sure enough. The young master went down the mountain for me, even though I'm such an insignificant person, the young master actually kept me in his heart. Hayes, I won't hide it from you. Demonic cultivators aren't that different from you cultivators. It's just that we have the ability to use the power of demonic beasts because we have their blood in our body. As for our cultivation, naturally it's eating, devouring flesh and blood, and sucking the power of demonic beasts. It's that simple? You've tied me up too tightly. It's inconvenient for me to speak. Can you release me? I promise I won't escape. Fine. Of course, it's not that simple. If you want to use the power of demonic beasts, your mental state will be eroded, and you will become bloodthirsty and slowly lose your sense of self. 
Then why are all of you still obsessed with the power of demonic beasts? That is naturally because that power has an addictive sense of pleasure. Once you dabble in it, you won't be able to quit. This kind of feeling is like, it's like. Ah, come with me. Lu Chao Ji, goodbye. Sect leader, change the direction quickly. Senior sister Luo Bing has been captured. Don't need to panic, she won't escape. Strongest, newest star? He also got tricked by me. As expected, all men are the same. He just has nicer skin, that's all. Release me quickly, my sect leader will definitely find you. When he finds you, you will not die a good death. Such a dainty face, but why do you say such terrible words? Do you want me to let you go? Fine then. What exactly are you planning? There are no cultivators here, so you don't have to pretend anymore. Stop talking nonsense, what am I pretending? So pure, this aura is clearly only at the second rank, but she has an even purer aura of demonic beast as compared to a fourth rank demonic cultivator like me. Stop acting, you're also a demonic cultivator, I can tell with a glance. Nonsense. I am one of young lord's people, I'm not a demonic cultivator. Then I shall prove it to you. Your stomach is full of the power of demonic beasts. If you were really a normal human, could you store all these powers? If an ordinary cultivator devoured the power of demonic beasts, they would explode and die immediately. If you aren't a demonic cultivator, then what are you? The spiritual energy that young lord gave me are the powers of demonic beasts? Young lord, what are you trying to make me do? How did your small body even endure the power of three types of ancient demonic beasts? There was a demonic cultivator in the Purple Moon cult called Yao Yi who went insane and was reduced into a monster after bearing the power of just one ancient demonic beast. But that person has already climbed onto unparalleled heights within the demonic cultivators. So, what kind of demonic cultivator are you? I'm not a demonic cultivator, I'm not. It doesn't matter whether you're one or not. Since your body has such a powerful storing capacity. If I eat you, your ability will be transferred to my body, that's all that matters. If I activate this formation, your spiritual energy will begin to slip away. This formation is truly marvelous. After stripping away the power of demonic beasts inside your body, I will eat your flesh to prevent myself from losing my mind. I've thought of everything, haven't I? Without further ado, let's begin. Ah. Uh, before you die, I would like to talk to you a little more. I have already long discovered that you have the power of demonic beasts within you. But it's a shame that you can only store them and are unable to use them. What a shame, what a waste. Actually, for us demonic cultivators to use the power of demonic beasts, we only need to accept the existence of the power within us, and then we are able to freely convert it into our spiritual energy. I see, I understand now. El Lu Chao Ge. How, how did you? How did I find this place so quickly? Your storage ring was full of women's lingerie. You are smarter than other female demonic cultivators. You know how to make use of your figure. In order to make me drop my guard. The cultivation methods you mentioned are all true. You used the truth to deceive me to earn my trust because you had already noticed the extraordinariness of Luo Bing at that time. No, you didn't see through my plan, otherwise, you wouldn't have let me take her away. If you didn't take her away, would you have happily said all those important words just now? You, from the start, you. I'm a cultivator. I do not know how demonic cultivators convert the power of demonic beasts, so I only needed that line, that's all. You've worked hard, let's go home. Young lord, young lord, am I important? Of course, what are you talking about? T then why did you insert the power of demonic beasts into my body? This. Is it because Luo Bing really is a demonic cultivator?
This is bad. Luo Bing's Dao heart is not stable. If my next words aren't what she wants to hear, her mind might really be eaten by the ancient demonic beasts. Young lord, please answer me. Is Luo Bing really a demonic cultivator? Regardless of whether Luo Bing is an ordinary person, or a demonic cultivator, or a demon. What's going on? Earthquake? Sect leader, this is bad. All the demonic beasts in the mountain are rushing over here. Demonic beasts feast on each other to grow. Those things must have sensed the pure aura released by Luo Bing and have rushed over to eat her. How dare you? Sect leader, there's fifth rank monsters within these demonic beasts. Young Lord, this is the first time I've been so close to Young Lord, I can even hear his heartbeat, but why must it be during this kind of situation, I? If I'm really a demonic cultivator, how can I still stay by Young Lord's side? Wonderful. There are many demonic beasts in this mountain, this is a good chance for this venerable one to clear all of them. Die. Sword Domain Slaughter. Young Lord executed an entire area's worth of demonic beasts for me. To continue with our previous topic, you must always remember, no matter where and whenever you are, no matter what identity you have, and no matter what form you may be in, you will always be my M.O. Sex Disciple, Luo Bing. No matter where and whenever you are, no matter what identity you have, and no matter what form you may be in, you will always be my M.O. Sex Disciple, Luo Bing. Young Lord. Yes, Young Lord. I will always be M.O. Sex Disciple, Luo Bing. It looks like this girl has regained her mind. Then it's time to end this. The sect leader right now is as powerful as an immortal and handsome too. Clean up the area and don't waste the inner core of these monsters. Take away the materials that can be used as well. Yes, young lord. Although Young Lord's embrace is very comfortable, I can't be too attached or the Young Lord might dislike it. Sect Leader, I've picked up a lot of inner cores, and I heard Master say that these materials can be used to create pills and forge weapons. They're indeed useful, so you must search for them carefully and not miss a single one. MHM MHM If I let the Child of Luck pick up the spoils, will it increase the luck? After all, in games, the child of luck will always increase the luck by 30% or more. Oh right, sect leader, there's something which I'm not sure whether I should tell you or not. Speak. The sword sovereign came to M.O. sect and guided us while you were away, and at that time, he said that senior sister Luo Bing seems to have a relative in Luzhou, and that relative appears to be the sword sovereign's old friend as well. The sword sovereign really said that? Definitely. There was no open world map in the game during my previous life, but Luzhou is the territory of the Judge of Death and is also the home to the most unique race in Tianqian world, the Demon Race. The Demon Race is neither like the demonic cultivators nor the human race. They're human, but at the same time, they're not. I don't know much about them either. Since that's the case, I will have to find a time to visit the mysterious Luzhou. Could the old friend of the Sword Sovereign be from the demon race? Or is the person one of the Judge of Death's people? But before that, I have to wrap things up regarding Luo Bing being able to absorb the power of demonic beasts. Whether she goes or stays will depend entirely on her. Young Lord, please follow Luo Bing's words. Are you certain you thought it through? Young Lord, Luo Bing is certain. Luo Bing is willing to accept the power of the demonic beasts. You don't have to do it if you don't want to. With this venerable one present, no one can bully you. Luo Bing doesn't want to become the burden of the M.O. sect, and as a disciple, I have to do my part for the sect. The calamity is approaching, and as a member of M.O. sect, Luo Bing cannot sit by and watch. 
This time, young Lord even asked the outer disciples to reach the third rank, while I am still at the second rank. How can I still call myself the senior sister? All right, you may use the power of demonic beasts within your body. But if you feel anything wrong, stop immediately and don't force yourself to press on. Yes. Immerse your mind and accept their existence just like what the female demonic cultivator said. Luo Bing is able to convert the power of demonic beasts into spiritual energy, but that demonic cultivator also said that the power will erode the mind if anything goes wrong. I will abandon the power of these seventh rank and above ancient demonic beasts and save Luo Bing. Second rank great completion. The conversion of the demonic beast powers is successful. She has broken through and reached the second rank great completion. HM, Luo Bing's spiritual energy is increasing rapidly, but her realm is still stagnant. Why is she saving her spiritual energy like how I save my EXP points? After a moment, Hugh, young lord, Luo Bing has finished the conversion. Ah. All right. Do you feel unwell? This girl seems to have grown a little. My body feels bloated, but otherwise I'm fine. Furthermore, young lord, Luo Bing really wants to vent it now. All right, I will satisfy your request. Master, are you looking for me? HM? This eldest disciple with no sense of presence actually transmitted sound when he's clearly standing directly in front of me. Is he playing tricks now that he's at the fifth rank? I look for you because I want you to spar with Luo Bing. Brother, all the ghost monsters at the mountain floor have almost been eliminated. Eh? Hey, Ting he, he, he broke through the fifth rank. That's right, he's now at the fifth rank. This venerable one's eldest disciple has officially stepped into the realm of a great cultivator. How did brother do it? The Great Cultivator Realm isn't something you can reach just by wanting to. He's just at 5th rank Great Completion. There's nothing to make a big fuss about. In the future, it might be the 6th rank or the 7th rank. Brother gave Hei Ting a great miracle. Looks like I can now stay on Danqing Peak forever. Both of you can begin your spar. Yes. Watch, your disciple will give you a big surprise. As long as this sinful disciple doesn't become my sister-in-law, I will not be surprised. Senior brother, please enlighten me. Senior brother, watch yourself. This sword energy is actually similar to one released by a fifth rank. What did brother do to Luo Bing? This. This is actually the sword energy from my slash. The young lord gave me a really huge present. I should be able to handle this slash with my current strength. Can Hei Ting take that slash? Of course. You've let me win, senior brother. Of course, he couldn't take it. How can a second rank win over a fifth rank? How is this possible? That slash just now is like suddenly erupting after suppressing it for 10 years. It's kind of similar to my sword cultivation technique before. As for Hei Ting. Hei Ting, you don't have to hold back. You can fight normally, but just don't injure Luo Bing. This brat, he wasn't serious at all from the start and only wanted to let his junior sister win. How can he not be serious? You aren't this venerable one. You are just a weak fifth rank. That's all. Master saw through my thoughts. I can't give up the win anymore. We're going again? In that case, please enlighten me again, senior brother. So fast. Oh no. Which one is the real senior brother? That explosive sword energy, if there's no gaps in the defenses, then there's no way to attack. Senior brother saw through my strategy. This this is senior brother's sword intent. How terrifying. How can I possibly defeat senior brother when he is serious? Stop, the victor has already been decided. 
Senior brother, that was so powerful. You aren't bad either, that slash just now was comparable to the fifth rank. Your senior brother is fifth rank after all, if he'd lost to you, that would have been illogical. Thank you master for your guidance. Luo Bing, when you integrate more of that spiritual energy into your body and break through, your future will be limitless. Thank you sick leader for your blessings. Luo Bing will diligently follow your teachings. I'm so curious. What exactly did brother do to her? Feel free to use the thing that I gave to you. This venerable one will give you more in the future. Give more in the future? What exactly is it? Thank you, sect leader. Your elated expression is making your master very suspicious. I must ask brother and get to the bottom of this. Burp days with the sect leader here is so wonderful. Why did little Lizzy invite your brother out for a walk today? Could it be that you haven't been close to your brother recently? She did it again. My sister has really grown up. Your brother was too rude. I won't be able to pinch little Lizzie's cheeks anymore. Pinch, you can pinch. Recently, brother has been hiding more and more things from me. If even my brother is not honest towards me, I would be hurt. That's right, from the perspective of little Lizzie, ever since I came back from Chun Chiu Mountain, I've been hiding many things from her. As her brother, I had neglected her a little. In the past, father and mother left early and brother had always told me everything, but right now, it seems like there's many things you don't want to tell me anymore. I don't know what brother gave to Luo Bing and Hei Ting. I don't know what interesting things brother saw when you went to Chun Chiu Mountain. I also only knew that brother had two domains along with everyone else. You're a sect leader, and also everyone's martial uncle, and now, you're also the newest star in all of Tianqian. But, in Dong Li's heart, you're just my brother. Little Lizzie's words really make an older brother ashamed to hold his head up. After all, she, who has always been mature, has only ever had us in her heart. Let's go. Your brother will tell you about everything that has happened in this period of time. MHM Brother The two walked among the mountain foliage of Danqing Peak. Lu Chao Ge talked incessantly, while Lu Dong Li listened. This moment of time belongs to this pair of brother and sister. That Chun Chiu Mountain Deacon is really evil, he actually wanted to assassinate brother. And that Snow Wolf King was also very dangerous. It was fortunate you survived and scathed. And how dare that demonic cultivator ambush brother. But it's fortunate you got out of everything with no injuries, the world under the mountain is indeed very scary. It's safer to stay on Danqing Mountain. I have to strengthen the mountain protective array even more. That's what you concluded out of all of this? H.M.? What's wrong? Yangshu is back. He stepped into Danqing Peak. You brat, you must have allocated all your attribute points onto your divine sense. I didn't even sense it. Informing Martial Uncle Sect Leader and Master, M.O. Sect's disciple Yangshu, has returned to the sect. Let's go and see how far your disciple has advanced. M.H.M. Did Master change the Great Array again? Why did the old unlocking chant not work? And this array is way stronger than when I left the mountain. Yangshu, enter. Yes, Master. Our MO sect has really changed a lot these few years, those outer disciples outside the mountain gate. Whoa! Look, there's a pretty woman. What, that's clearly a cute boy that looks feminine. My ass, I'll bet with my two heads that she is a woman. Look at the Adam's apple, big brother. You're already level 20. Can't you see with your eye power? Marshall brother, you're so beautiful. Tell us your name. If you can't enter the inner mountain tonight, why don't you come to my little hut to rest a little? It was really lucky that Master helped me unlock the great array. There's finally a beautiful Marshall brother. The two inner disciple martial brothers that we have turned out to be mainly gloomy, short, and unattractive. 
Short. Gloomy. Unattractive. Whatever, I'll always be our Lulu's mistress. Shut up. He's clearly me. No one steals the sect leader away from me. As long as I'm alive, all of you will be concubines. Everyone is actually waiting for me. Yangshu greets sect leader and master. Second senior sister, third senior brother. HM? This is your junior sister, Xiao Qiu. Should I call you senior brother or senior sister? It's senior brother. Then Xiao Qiu greets the pretty senior brother. Essie senior brother. It looks like everyone in MO sect has improved a lot these few years. I must also work hard too. Qing Zhou. The Endless Sea. It arrived in the end. Su such a massive wave. Why did it appear here? Run. Dear, stop taking things with you. It's not good. A huge wave like this would destroy the entire village. Covering the sun and sky. The seawater did not fall. ISIS, there are cultivator protecting us. WH, which lord cultivator is it? Look over there. It's old Luo who braids straw sandals. He's actually a cultivator. We were actually blind to his greatness. These waves are all created by that. The ninth rank, in this world, how long has it been since a ninth rank appeared? Juniors, look carefully. It's here. It's finally here. This day. I've waited for decades. The calamity has begun. Senior. Can I lend you my strength? Senior Luo, does this mean that you don't want me to interfere? Congratulations, Senior. Little girl, you are more to my liking than this sour scholar. Well done. Well done. All these winds and waves, they're so majestic. Come out, you beast. Ancient Trajan Beast. Frigid Prajan King. This this is a ninth rank dragon beast. No, a dragon beast at this level is a dragon king. Humph. A thing like you is just worthy enough for this old man's final strike. Junior Brother Yang, you said that when you traveled to the seaside, you encountered a water ghost in the third rank. That's right, that time the water ghost wanted to eat a pair of mother and daughter, even though I knew that my abilities were inferior, I still had to draw my sword and engage it. But I was too weak and was beaten into a pulp, and then... I lost consciousness. When I woke up, I realized that I was sleeping in a house, and beside me was a grandpa braiding straw shoes. Were you the one who saved me? That's right, since you're awake, from this day forth, you will stay here and draw water from the well for me every day. I've sealed your cultivation, if your performance in the future is good, this old man will naturally release the seal. Yes. Although I have some complaints about him, he was the person who saved me after all, so I did what he said. But I realized afterwards that Grandpa was actually one of the four divine swordsmen in Qingzhou alongside the sword sovereign. The F4 Divine Swordsman. Junior Brother Yang is really blessed by the heavens. Yes. And when Grandpa sent me off for a holiday, he even gave me a pair of shoes, and these shoes fit me perfectly. This is strange. If Senior Luo Hashan wanted to accept Yang Shu as his disciple, he would naturally not let him leave. But why did he let him go now? Could it be that Yang Shu was really there just to draw water for him? Why don't I verify it? Yang Shu, take out your sword and show it to this venerable one. My sword? Sect leader, here is Yang Shu's sword. Brother, why do you want to look at Yang Shu's sword? I want to see if our little Yang Shu is worthy of receive ING Senior Luo's favor. So heavy, 
This is clearly similar to the sword nurturing technique of compressing years of spiritual energy into the sword. As expected of my M.O. Sex disciple, you have already received the true teachings of Senior Luo. Ah, did Grandpa really view me as his direct disciple? I thought I was just a menial disciple. Junior Brother Yang caught the eye of one of the four divine swordsmen. But Yang Shu's talent isn't that extraordinary. Why did he catch Senior Luo's eyes? There are two reasons. The first is that while Yang Shu's innate talent is indeed ordinary, he possesses excellent character. Even though he may look like this, he is a courageous man when he needs to be. Grandpa did mention similar words. Number two, Yang Shu's sword is made from Ant Ning. Ant Ning is Sword Sex's famous weapon forger. The natal swords she bestows are of top quality, if not the highest quality. The quality of the sword is extremely critical to Senior Luo's swordsmanship. Yang Shu must have been selected because of this too. It looks like it's real. Ah. I thought that I could boast about me getting rescued by Senior Jiang when I fought the reptile monster. How am I going to boast now? He was rescued by a member of the Four Divine Swordsmen, and he even received his true teachings. But Senior Jiang is sect leader's Dao lover. Getting rescued by Senior Jiang is like me receiving the good luck of the sect leader. And the sect leader will become the future world number one. If I look at it this way, it means I win. Brother, did you really use your strength to pull out Yang Shu's sword just now? I used about 70% of my strength, but didn't manage to pull it out. It seems that Senior Luo's hidden sword nurturing technique is indeed marvelous. Even 70% of Brother's strength couldn't pull out Yang Shu's sword. Yang Shu is only at third rank right now. The sword nurturing technique that Old Spirit taught me was a simplified version. If I'd learned this skill, that 10 year slash would probably have been stronger by multiple times. But it's a bit ridiculous to only be able to unsheathe the sword 10 times in a lifetime, that's too extreme. Since Yanshu's sword is already this powerful, won't Senior Luo's sword be even more impressive than my master's? Who is talking about me behind my back? If this is the 10th slash, I'm afraid that it will probably be more powerful than the Sword Sovereign. Even more powerful than the Sword Sovereign? Yangshu, I'm curious, how many slashes does Senior Luo have left? Replying to sect leader, Grandpa once told me that he has a final slash left. Grandpa also said that if he didn't meet a worthy opponent, he would bring his sword into his coffin with him and never use it. His words are quite overbearing. In that case, did Senior Luo ever say what rank would be worthy of receiving this slash? I do not know either, Grandpa just said. That regardless, that Sour Scholar isn't worthy. Sour Scholar? Sour Scholar is referring to the Sword Sovereign. Sword Sovereign. Sour Scholar. The last time the Sword Sovereign came to visit Grandpa, Grandpa said that if there was a chance he would use this slash, he will inform the Sword Sovereign to experience it. HSSS Those words are so cool. According to records, in ancient times, there were once nine-headed eighth-ranked dragon beasts which ravaged the world, the longest of which was 30 meters long. But you have already exceeded 100 meters. Judging by your body form, it seems that your existence has long exceeded that of the ancient Enine Dragon World Ravager. It's just like what the record said, before the start of the calamity, there will be a ninth rank demonic monster who will come first to display its power. It was a three-headed flame ape in the records, and this time, it is Frigid Giant Dragon. But in the past, there was the Qing Emperor. In this current Tianxian world, this ninth rank giant dragon is already the pinnacle of this world. Who can stop it? If Senior Luo is planning to sacrifice his life, I will do it instead. But if something happened to you, who would protect Qingzhou then? There needs to be someone guarding each of the four great continents. We can't fight it ourselves. Qingzhou still has my junior brother, and my junior brother's abilities aren't much lower than mine. Besides, the young generation of my Qingzhou will have to bear great responsibilities sooner or later. Ji Chang Kong is indeed not bad, but it's too early to wish for the young generation to shoulder great responsibilities. 
My disciple Nanwu is as renowned as the Sword Sovereign's disciple Yu Yu, but they're not at the level of shouldering great responsibilities. The Sword Sovereign is asking too much. He must be talking. About Chao Ji. I wonder how he is now. If he were to fight with someone, please don't let his face be damaged. Everyone, stop talking. It's not your turn to deal with this beast. There are also differences within the ninth rank. You are barely worthy of my final slash, but I'm still a little disappointed in you. You're strong, even stronger than this old man, and even stronger than anyone in this world. But you are weaker than my sword. Are we really not going to act? Since this dragon is just a display of power before the calamity, why don't we attack it together? Senior Luo waited for such an enemy for his entire life. Even if we were to act, we'll do it after Senior Luo has his fun. After all, this might be the only chance he has in his entire life. Old friend, this will be the final time. Speaking of which, I actually dislike this world. I've disliked it ever since I was young. Hey! You bastard, you dare to steal my steamed buns? Stop eating. I'm so hungry, so hungry, so hungry. You bastard. You steal my steamed buns, I will break your legs. I'll see if you still dare to do this in the future. This gaze. How dare you glare at me, I'm going to break your other leg. So painful. I can't stand up anymore. Scram. Don't take shelter from the rain at my place. You thief. Go away. Humph. Go away. The further the better. Go away. You thief. It was lucky I ate a few bites earlier, but I'm still so hungry. Am I about to die? So good. Such a delicious grilled fish. Should I steal it? No, no more. Ouch. A person like me should just die. No one in this world is like me anyways. Do you want some? Hey, are you asking me? Eat if you want to. Don't eat if you don't want to. In this leaking rundown temple, is there a third person? I want to eat. You're eating so fast. Aren't you afraid that I poisoned it? It's better to die full than to die starving. You live quite a free life. I don't have parents, and now both of my legs are broken. I may be eating fish today, but I might die tomorrow, so what's there to be afraid of? The bones have shattered and I don't have the abilities to treat your legs. But as for the person who broke them, I can help you take revenge. What does this have to do with you? I exchanged my legs for steamed buns. I don't have a grudge. Do you really think like this? Of course, if I dare to do it, I dare to face up to the consequences. I've always been like this. Good, good, good. This is fate. I thought you were just a poor boy, but this is an opportune meeting arranged by the heavens. What are you talking about? I won't eat your fish for free. If you need any help, feel free to tell me. What's your name? Everyone calls me Little Beggar, Little Thief. I don't have parents, so I don't have a name. That's perfectly fine. Follow me. Why you are a cultivator? That's right, and I want to take you in as my disciple. What do you say? Of course I agree. All right, then from this day forth, you shall inherit my surname Luo. And as for your name, look at all these great rivers and mountains. They are so majestic. In that case, you shall be called Che Shan. Luo He Shan, that's a good name. I like it. He Shan, I have a calling. It is to protect all lives in Qingzhou from danger. You're called He Shan, and so your name has the meaning of protecting the rivers and mountains. Protecting the rivers and mountains. 
Master, I was bullied at that time and did not bear good will towards the humans of the world. Protecting the rivers and mountains is also protecting your wish. You said that I was too sharp and too violent and wanted me to weave straw sandals. But the more I weave them, the more infuriated I feel. At first, I thought you wanted to quell my violence. But I found out later that you wanted to suppress my desire to unsheath my sword. The more I weaved straw sandals, the more I wanted to draw my sword. The more the thought of draw ing my sword accumulated in my mind, the more powerful the sword will be when it is drawn. But that one time, when I was weaving sandals for that kid, my heart calmed down slightly. Grandpa, have you heard? My martial uncle drew his sword and killed a dragon beast. He even said, With only a three-foot sword in my life, death to all dragons who cross my path. It's so cool. Death to all dragons who cross my path. Nice. Very nice. Sour scholar, you better look carefully. Whether you can observe the sword and enter the ninth rank will depend on today. Observe the sword and enter the ninth rank. What a bold statement. Yes. Come, ninth rank dragon. Your life shall be mine to take. Senior Luo's tenth slash, just how staggering will it be? I was once lucky enough to witness the power of the ninth slash. At that time, the Eye of Chaos had the most vigorous fluctuations in 10,000 years and stirred up massive waves that almost devoured the entire Qingzhou. W.H. What is going on? Why is there such a gigantic wave? Is the world abandoning humankind? It's a cultivator. Which cultivator was that? He was able to destroy that apocalyptic wave in one slash. Th that is Ji Chan Kong, who ranks second among the four divine swords men in Qing Zhou. See this. T there's more. It's a threefold wave this time. It's over. That slash just now used up all my spiritual energy. Even if I force out a slash, it still won't get rid of this threefold wave. What should I do? WH who was it this time? Are we really saved? What's going on? I knew it was you, taking your own sweet time, you're too slow. Junior brother flew way too fast, I couldn't catch up in time. Whatever, although you came late, you managed to resolve the crisis in time. I didn't expect the fluctuations this time to stir up threefold gigantic waves. HM? Why did the sky turn dark? TH there's more. Bastard, does the Eye of Chaos want to destroy the entire Qingzhou this much? There's actually more. It's even bigger than before. This time, no one will be able to escape. Who can save us? This, this. What a powerful slash. It's him. Junior brother, even I can't defend against that slash just now. Compared to ordinary people, I can only resist for half a breath. That's just Senior Luo's ninth slash. He still has his tenth one. Of course, I know that. What I meant is, can you take that slash? If Junior brother can't take it, then naturally I can't as well. As expected, after all, I'm only one step behind you. How much stronger will the 10th slash be compared to the 9th before? Sour Scholar, remember this. With only a 3-foot sword in my life, death to all dragons who cross my path. If only this old man could see the kid that said this, how interesting would it be? Step back. This is the ninth rank? What terrifying power. C. 
Senior Luo's aura had disappeared. His presence completely vanished from this world, even my unity of heaven and humanity isn't able to sense him. Come out, you insignificant human. This slash. How did he do it? The loath slash. Disappear from this world. My sword will not allow you to wreak havoc upon Qingzhou. The disaster has been destroyed, and Senior Luo seems unscathed. It looks like after the 10th slash, Senior Luo won't be able to wield his sword again. Little Monk, the power of the 10th slash is as destructive to the opponent as it is to the user's body. No sword and human can survive this slash, and that includes me. Senior Luo's face. My old friend, this is not enough, this is far from enough. Go crazy with me once more, after all, this is the final time. The sword Dao has been stagnant for far too long. Someone has to blaze a path, a path towards the ninth rank. Remember this light, the sword Dao has been in darkness for 10,000 years. It is time for you to take the first step. Onwards. Onwards. A. Senior Luo. Little Yangshu. What do you think of Grandpa's Slash? Sword Sect Hell of Swords. Fifth Rank First Heavenly Lair. I should have caught up to him at this stage, right? Congratulations, Senior Brother Yu Yu, for reaching the realm of a great cultivator. TH that is. Fifth Rank Second Heavenly Lair. Yu Yu thanks Senior for his guidance. Breakthrough, I've broken through too. Thank you very much for Senior's guidance. My spiritual energy is increasing rapidly. Just looking at that ray of sword light is hurtling my rank forward. Thank you, Senior, for your guidance. Which Senior was it that unleashed that slash? Could it be Lord Sword Sovereign? Senior Luo Hashan is about to fall. Stop pretending. Isn't this step also part of your plan? Sword Sex Leader. This slash by Luo Hashan is indeed worthy of the title of world number one, but even if it's him. Remember, I'll be the only one who wins. In that case, I will be looking in anticipation, sword sex sect leader. Thank you, Senior Luo, for protecting Qing Zhou and protecting Tian Xuan. Luo Hashan's slash has still not stopped. It charges onwards, stabbing into the deep sky of Tianxian world and illuminating the path forward for countless people. Perhaps they may not be able to enter the way of the sword because of this, but the seeds of hope have taken root in everybody's heart, just like a tiny spark waiting silently to transform into a field of flames. Shifting time slightly earlier. After greeting Marshal Uncle and Master and chatting with my Marshal brothers and sisters, I finally managed to excuse myself and return to my bamboo hut. It's already very late. But the feeling of being home is so comfortable. Everything I'm familiar with is around me, including my Marshal Uncle and Master who care for me and my new junior sister. If only Grandpa was here, would he have enjoyed the excitement? He would definitely lose his temper and pull my ears again, right? Ha ha ha. But the straw sandals Grandpa weaved for me is really comfortable. Grand. Grandpa. Old friend, it looks like our end is near. In that case, I will give all the intent I've accumulated in my life to the people of Qingzhou. And that kid. Only Yangshu is different from everyone in his heart. I give this slash to all sword cultivators in Qingzhou, be enlightened. Killing a ninth rank gigantic dragon? It's not enough. Giving guidance to the four powers of Tianqian? It's not enough. From this day forth, I shall become Qingzhou's younger generations of sword cultivators. One time sword master. With all my heart and soul.
Senior Luo has completely released the sword intent he accumulated throughout his life without hiding and with no cover at all. We thank Senior for guiding the common people. From the state of Little Lizzie, it looks like this slash has enlightened her, and it feels significant. Luo Hashan, one of the four divine swordsmen, has unleashed his final slash. This scene is indeed different from my previous life. Although I was a spear cultivator in my previous life, I've also heard of the grand reputation of this slash, and I've seen this classic scene many times in the forums. But I remember very clearly that the power of the slash I see today far exceeds the one in my previous life. What exactly changed Luo Hashan? This golden surge of sword intent is complete and powerful. Only with a clear and open heart can one enter such a realm. Could it be because of Yangshu? In my previous life, there was no Lu Chao Ge, so naturally there was no Yangshu. It looks like I brought about a butterfly effect again. All I did was accept a martial nephew, and I changed the fate of one of the four divine swordsmen. Based on the system's evaluation and the assessment of your overall strength, you are eligible to receive one effective guidance from Luo Hashan. It's here. Effective guidance, this slash covered the entire Qingzhou, everyone should be enlightened. But the system is actually so generous this time, effective guidance can only be triggered by 8th rank expert giving sincere guidance. Since it's also based on the evaluation of my overall strength, it means that not everyone will be the same as me. Based on the system's evaluation and the assessment of your overall strength, you are eligible to receive one effective guidance from Luo Hashan. If everyone received effective guidance, then the entire Qingzhou would immediately become an area of cheaters. In that case, what will be the effective guidance of the strongest slash in the world currently? To think that the effective guidance this time would be this. Hugh. 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 Tell me the truth. It's reachable. It's reachable. He was already half a step away from the ninth realm. This means that. It's good that you have such confidence. Ha ha ha. Catch. My old pal has a longer lifespan than me. It can be used one more time. Use it to withstand another attack from the Sea of Chaos. Senior Luo's sword is broken to this state, and yet it's still surging with sword intent. I have one more final wish, so I will leave now. Farewell, Senior. Tianxian World Qingzhou MO Sex Dangyang Mountain. So this is the MO Sex that Little Yangshu has always been talking about. Someone barged in. No, it's the Senior that made that heaven-shaking slash. He's not an enemy. Senior, please come and go as you wish. Expanding Omine Sense. Little Yangshu, where are you? Grandpa doesn't have much time left. Strange, this is really strange. This tiny MO sect holds so many talents. Retracting divine sense. Its future potential is limitless. Faster, I have to run faster, otherwise I can't make it. That's right, I can use my sword. You brat, where are you going? This voice is... Grandpa? Grandpa? Stop sobbing, I get annoyed looking at it. Grandpa, sorry, I, I can't hold it in. Grandpa only had one more slash left, so using it, using it would mean. This brat. Come here. Grandpa, what happened to your face? Kneel. Grandpa is going to hit my head again, but as long as he's still here, he can hit me as much as he wants, even if it's painful. I was too strict on you, little Yangshu. Your sword will be very heavy in the future. Let Grandpa help you a little. Grandpa. Look at you. Shoes are meant to be worn. You don't need to maintain it so well. Clean and free of dust. If I didn't know better, I would have thought it's some treasure. Of course I have to maintain it well. Grandpa only gave me this pair of straw sandals. Grandpa? 
Farewell, Senior Luo. Farewell to the One Sword Master of all sword cultivators in Singju. Farewell to Divine Swordsman Luo, who cleaved a path to the ninth rank for all future generations. Grandpa. 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 I can't hold it in anymore. I know you don't like me crying, but I really can't hold it in. I really can't. Boo hoo hoo. Junior Lu Dongli from MO Sec bids Divine Swordsman Senior Luo farewell. Yangshu spent so many years with Senior Luo, they're probably as close as grandfather and grandson. If I leave him alone, I'm afraid he might do something foolish. Luo Bing, go find Hei Ting and MO Dongfang and look after Yangshu in the forest. Divine Swordsman Senior Luo has passed away. Yes. Master. If you really can't find your senior brother Hei Ting, just go with Mo Dongfang. Yes, understood. Senior brother has already reached the fifth rank, and his presence is extremely minimal. He's indeed very hard to find. Master's message sounded so urgent that she even said there's no need to find senior brother. This is an emergency. I have to go to junior brother Yang immediately. I have to find junior brother M.O. first, then find senior brother. Senior brother, junior brother M.O., little Chio, you guys. We all heard master's sound transmission. Yangshu need us right now. Let's quickly go. M.H.M. Brother has been meditating here for a long time. Why is he still not moving? Could it be that senior Luo slash has greatly enlightened brother? Yes. That's right. With brother's talents, this must be the case. Rewards from the effective guidance, harmony of heaven and earth, X2 do you wish to redeem your rewards? To think that the effective guidance this time would be two of these. I originally thought that witnessing senior Luo's slash that is equal to a ninth ranks would give me swordsmanship points. I didn't expect it to be the harmony of heaven and earth. This is not bad too. Redeem rewards. Harmony of Heaven and Earth The power of water in my body is almost at the level where I can do whatever I wish. The thing that Brother Enlightened was. The power of heaven and earth? It's going to rain. Is this because of Brother's power? The spiritual energy is not spreading. He's using his thoughts to influence heaven and earth. So this is what Brother Enlightened. Senior Brother Shu is crying, but there's no sound. Senior Brother Yangshu is very sad right now. We just need to accompany him. It's going to rain. Little Chio doesn't like Senior Brother Shu to be so sad. I have to do something for him. The sword spirit is dying, but its power has not been weakened. If a suitable person wields it, he can use the power of the ninth rank one more time. Can you use it? I can't. HM? Even you can't use it? Can you do it if you reach the ninth rank? Even if I reach the ninth rank, I can't do it. My character is completely different from the last slash by Senior Luo before he died. It will not be content if I wield it. The sword sovereign is fair and peaceful his entire life. Every strike of his sword is righteous and dignified. While Senior Luo's sword is sharp and piercing with an extreme fierceness to it. The two of them are indeed not suited for each other. But if it's my junior brother, he should be able to wield it. The second of the four divine swordsmen, Ji Chan Kong. His character is indeed suitable for this sword. So are you going to bring this sword back to him? No, it has a place where it belongs. Senior Luo guarded this sea all his life and died after slaying the dragon, so his sword. Go. His sword will become the sea suppressing sword. Umidba, people who live along the river often hang swords under bridges to pray for the suppression of river dragons and the absence of flooding. Now, Senior Luo's sword has the same effect as this. 
If Emperor Qing's revelations are right, in the worst scenario, we only have one more year left to prepare. Do you have confidence of reaching the ninth rank in one year? Not quite. Senior Luo did slash a slit for me to peer into the brilliance of the ninth rank and above, but one year would be tough. One year is indeed too tight. I've received some enlightenment as well, but I might not even be able to reach a step away from the ninth rank in a year's time. How should this calamity be dealt with? But there is no need to be so pessimistic. I advise everyone to meet a person. If he grows, perhaps we will have some hope in this coming calamity. What person? My Ching Zhou's MO sect leader, Lu Chao Ji. Lu Chao Ji? Even for me, this name has been very popular these few years. But he is only at the fifth rank. No matter how fast he grows, he will still. If he grows fast enough, I would be more confident in this coming calamity. The Sword Sovereign has such a high evaluation of him. Isn't this evaluation a bit too exaggerated? If there is really a person that can change this calamity by himself, it can only be the ancient Emperor Qing. Can that mere Lu Chao Ge compare to the Emperor Qing? No one can compare to him. I've met Lu Chao Ge, and I'm prepared to give my divine charm to him when he reaches the seventh rank. Really? It's the truth, and I made a promise with Lu Chao Ge too. The divine charm of the Saintus, this would require the cost of dual cultivation. She really did it. This mad woman. We must meet this M.O. Sex Lu Chao Ge. Look, it's going to rain. This isn't rain. Someone interfered with heaven and earth. That's right. This rain was brought about by Lu Chao Ge. His power of heaven and earth has improved by a. No, by two folds. It's him. That's right, the person that my unity of heaven and earth sensed. Is him. This rain comes from M.O. Sect Lu Chao Ge. M.O. Sect's outer area. Why did this rain come suddenly? Do you think this rain has something to do with that sky-piercing sword? Yes, yes, yes. It poked a hole in the sky and made the sky weep. Nonsense. This is clearly because water is leaking from the hole the sword poked in the sky. All of you trash really don't know anything. This rain must be brought by sect leader. Brother, you're finally awake. This rain has been falling for a very long time. Right, it's time for the rain to stop. Disperse. My brother's power of heaven and earth has reached this level. So sure enough, it was the sect leader. This is so cool. It's so cool it's making me numb. Amazing. So awesome. Lu Chao Ge, the next time I see you, I will show you all of my charisma. Be crazy for me, Lu Chao Ge. This is also an example of Lu Chao Ge ensnaring the heart. Little Lizzy, how long have I been in seclusion? It wasn't long, brother. Did you have a major breakthrough this time? Compared to a breakthrough, guessing the secret of the ninth rank is a greater gain for me. Of course, it was only a little. What? The ninth rank, that is something that has not been seen for over 10,000 years. And a small part of the secret to the ninth rank was sensed by my brother just like that? Don't be so shocked. It was just a guess, an estimate, a theory, a prediction. Although brother is usually very flashy, you're always confident in your actions and your words. I've always trusted brother. Little Lizzie. You these few words are simply great. My good sister. In my previous life, Little Lizzie wasn't one of the world's protagonists. Her name wasn't known either. It's even more possible that she might have died silently and unknowingly during the calamity. But this life is different because you have your brother, the... Heaven's Chosen One. In this life, Little Lizzie and I will step into the ninth rank together. This is my one-sided promise to you. So, what's that tiny part of the ninth rank secret that you've sensed? When I understand it, or after I made some confirmations, I will tell you then. 
Don't worry, I will bring little Lizzie with me, and survive the calamity together. Brother, why do you suddenly say this kind of things? I, I don't like hearing it. I will definitely survive the calamity together with brother. Speaking of which, how's Yangshu? That sword raid penetrated heaven and earth, but it was also Senior Luo's last slash, and it probably consumed everything from him, including his life. Yangshu spent years living with him. He should be clearer about this than anyone. I told Hei Ting and the rest to go to him. MHM. That's fine too. For this kind of thing, he needs to rely on himself. That kid Yangshu has already spent a day collecting water. Master was worried that something would happen to him, so she sent me over to observe him. But he keeps collecting water. Is he trying to convert his grief into labor? Should we comfort him? It's all right. He just wants to vent his emotions. Let him be. That is. Junior sister Xiao Qiu, why is she sneaking about? Brother Yang Shu, are you there? Make a sound if you're there. Eh, if Brother Yang Shu isn't here, then he won't reply to me, so is he here or not? Junior sister, are you looking for me? Senior Brother Yang Shu, I found you. Wasn't it me that came up to her? Senior Brother Yang Shu, wait for a moment, let me scout the surroundings. There's no one around, the coast is clear. Senior Brother Yang Shu, Please squat down, I've something urgent to tell you. Please, please, senior brother. What is it? Senior brother Shu, can you secretly bring me down the mountain? Huh? Secretly bring you down the mountain? Be bring you down the mountain? Senior brother Shu, you must not tell sect leader and master. Eldest senior brother, second senior sister, and third senior brother will all take turns to secretly bring me down the mountain to play, but it's only once every ten days. I, I see. I can't make myself say no in front of Xiao Chiu's cuteness. Since senior brother Xu didn't reject me, that means you agree. Yay! Let's go right now. Eh. I'm going down the mountain. I'm going down the mountain. To buy Tom Hulu. With Master's character, her divine sense would always be covering the entire mountain. I'm afraid that she has long known about Xiao Chiu sneaking down the mountain, but pretends to not know about it. Yangshu is going down the mountain. Should I report this to sect leader and master? It's not a bad thing for Xiao Chiu to bring Yangshu down the mountain for a walk. No need to report. Your master already knows. Oh, right, and your martial uncle sect leader knows about it too. Yes, Master. Master's divine sense is so powerful, she must have already covered the entire Danqing mountain with it. What rank is she at now? Very suspicious. In our MO sect, is our renowned sect leader stronger, or Master who no one knows stronger? Steamed buns, steamed buns, freshly steamed buns. All the gold and silver beads you want are here. Come and take a look. 20% off on an accommodation and meals today. Receive a free breakfast too. Tom Hulu, tasty and sweet Tom Hulu. It's getting late. I should close for the day. My wife and mother at home should be waiting to have dinner with me back at home. Uncle, give me two sticks of Tom Hulu. Two sticks. Sure. You brought a new senior sister this time? It's senior brother. It's senior brother Shu. It's senior brother Hu. It's all right. Uncle isn't the first one to make this mistake. Senior brother Shu, here, for you. For me? Senior brother Shu wants two sticks? I, I want one stick, though. I don't want it, Xiao Chiu. You can have them both. You have to eat. I came down the mountain this time to treat senior brother Shu to Tom Hulu. Open your mouth, ah dash. So Xiao Kiwi wanted to come down the mountain for me. Mm -hmm. So sweet. My two sisters, look, aren't the two of them the M.O. Sec direct disciples we have been waiting for so many days? 
one of the five tower masters under heaven's secret Chu Hung. Which disciple is it? Should I use my charm to lure him and suck out some information away for our excellency? One of the S tower masters under heaven's secret dash. Yang. Stop saying nonsense. Who are they and what's their rank? One of the S tower masters under heaven's secret dash. Jean Ling. It's the Yangshu that just returned to the mountain, and that little disciple with extremely high talent, Xiao Qiu. If it's the two of them, we can act. Follow them for now, and make sure that there's no MO sect elder secretly protecting them. Yu Ying, you always just speak with your mouth, but make no effort with your actions. Yes, 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 senior sister Jean Ling always thought of everything. As expected of the face of our five tower masters, you are indeed completely different from those lackeys Xian Ji and Yu Ro. Even if Lu Chao Ji Yi is there, I will drain his life away. Senior brother Shu, isn't it MHM good? Mm -hmm. Since it's so sweet, then senior brother Shu, don't be sad anymore, okay? If I'm sad, I'll feel like eating sweets. As long as I eat one sweet, just one, I'll feel happy right away. Senior Brother Shu, one stick of Tom Hulu has so many sweets. But Xiao Qiu has used up all her allowances, I can only buy two sticks this time. Senior Brother Shu, I will leave this for you, if you're still not happy after finishing your stick, I... I will give this last piece to you, okay? The senior brothers and senior sister all said that Xiao Qiu is very protective of her food. Is Xiao Qiu not like that anymore? I, I am not willing to, but martial uncle sect leader taught me that powerful people must not let the important ones beside them become sad. Powerful. Then your martial uncle sect leader is really a kind gentleman. Who is it? It's already so late, it's not possible for someone to be on the mountain path. Since the both of you are so mature, won't you? Listen to this sister and follow me. Who are you? That sister wants to eat my Tom Hulu too? Don't be so nervous. Sister isn't a bad person. If you follow me, there will be endless Tom Hulu for you to eat. Don't come any closer. What kind of good person are there in the mountain wilderness? Are you a demonic cultivator? Third rank, great completion. Chu Han. Hey, hey, a pretty boy like you really says some ugly words. I'm so beautiful. How can I be a demonic cultivator? If you ask a person if they are a demonic cultivator, the person will be angry too. Third rank first heavenly layer. Should I run? This person's rank is higher than mine. Besides, if I make junior sister fall into danger and grandpa sees it, he will definitely look down on me. Fourth rank third heavenly layer. Yueying. Junior sister, perhaps this little brother likes a big senior sister like me. Oh no, there's someone behind me too, and her rank is even higher. They came prepared. Don't think about escaping, there's no chance. Who are you? I am a disciple of M.O. sect, and my sect leader is a great cultivator. They clearly planned this beforehand, I have to find a way to get junior sister out of this. Don't block the way home. Otherwise, I will split the world with one slash and make all of you bow under my three-foot sword. Sect leader told me that you can lose, but you must not lose terribly, and you must always win your display of strength. Since the both of you want to do it the hard way, this sister will give it to you. Earth Golem Golem Technique don't break them, they're more useful alive. Hold on tight. Mm -hmm. I only have 10 slashes, but for my junior sister's sake. This is the time to use it. Oh, quite impressive. But. My earth golem is not made for mud, but jade. What a tough defense. That slash that I've nurtured just now was equal to the sword energy of a fourth rank. But even if it's jade, I can slash it too. The second slash is equal to sword energy of the fifth rank. 
Sister told you so many times, your sword energy is useless. This. This. Technique backlash. How can someone at third rank in the first heavenly layer shatter my golem at the third rank great completion? Hugh. 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 Senior brother Shu, you're sweating so much. I, I'm all right. Grandpa once told me that if I pulled out my sword the second time with my third rank capabilities, I would be extremely fatigued, but I can still stand right now. It really got much lighter. Your sword will be heavy in the future. Let Grandpa support you for a bit. Grandpa. Senior brother Shu. Be careful. Mm -hmm. The third slash. Grandpa warned me that if I pull it out, my Tao body right now will definitely be shattered. But I can't care so much about it. Ah. So hot. Damn it. Sister Chu, your senior sister has helped you to bind him. You can do whatever you want now. I know. You brat. I will make you cough out blood too. Smash his face. A mere third rank and first heavenly layer dare to injure me? If His Excellency knows about this, how will I be able to serve him from now on? Smash him to pieces, leave only one breath for him to talk. Shao Chiyo, at the moment when it hits me. Break this silk weapon and escape as fast as you can. What about you, Senior Brother Shu? Sect leader and master will avenge me. You overdid it. We still have to pry Luo Hashan's secret sword nurturing technique out of him. Don't worry, His Excellency can search the soul. Besides, I'm only disabling him, not really killing him. It's more interesting to make this beautiful little guy crippled and force him to survive painfully. Sensing your brother, why are you here? H.M. He's fine? Voice transmission master knew that you were feeling down, so he sent me to follow you and protect you. Sure enough, something really happened. Who is this guy, and when did he show up? Why couldn't I sense him at all? Another one we don't know about came. Since you insist on becoming a hero, I will smash you too. Senior brother, be careful. Five to fifty powerful. Eldest senior brother is so awesome. That guy. That guy. Why do I feel like I've seen his information somewhere before, but why do I have no impression of it? Io. What's wrong, junior sister? This silk cloth is very hot. Shao Chiyo couldn't bear it. Both of you leave. Leave them to me. Yes. After leaving Junior Sister somewhere safe, I will be back. To think that he's able to break my weapon. This surge of sword energy, he's a fifth rank great cultivator. But such a frail person like him doesn't look like a great cultivator at all. Who exactly is he? He looks so familiar, but why can't I recall anything? You dare to be distracted? This is a good chance. Smash his head. Hugh. Now, I can go all out. Where, where did he go? Expand your divine sense quickly, he's at. Arg. I remember now. I remember now. I remember now. I didn't harm her life, but she shouldn't be able to stand for an hour. He's Lu Chao Ji's eldest disciple, Hei Ting. He's the person with the least presence in the entire M.O. sect, even I forgot about him. Hey Ting. M.O. sect, is there such a person? You used your weapon to burn my junior brother and sister, I must seek justice for them. Young man, you're too confident of yourself. Although he's Lu Chao Ji's eldest disciple, in the entire M.O. sect, he is still. Pardon my offense. The weakest. Sister Jean Ling. Divine Sense. So fast. Although your presence is very low, as long as I expand my Divine Sense and know your target, it's not hard to get past it. There's no fifth rank great cultivator as weak as you. Arg. 
as expected of our lower five towers, s strongest, Sister Jean Ling, you defeated him in one hit. Those trash Xian Ji and Yu Rou are indeed only capable of doing useless things. No, that person Hei Ting has not yet lost his ability to fight. Hei Ting, stand up, you can't fall here. You have to buy time for junior brother and sister to escape. You're a great cultivator. You're a disciple of M.O. Sect. Deal with him completely first, then bring all of them back with us. Yes. Go. So fast, can I really win against that? But if I fall here, Yang Shu and Xiao Kiwi will be captured too. Be but what? Can I even do? I only know how to wash dishes and sweep the floor. And no, don't think about that. Calm down. Think about what Master always taught me. Ah. Open your eyes. Hey Ting, do you know who is everyone's greatest enemy? HM? It's fear. It's the fear of going against someone stronger, the fear of losing, the fear of disrupting your own behavior. Defeat your fears, and you will have the chance to win, no matter how strong the opponent is. Master is right. I have to defeat my fears. I can't belittle myself. There. He. Can follow my speed? Humph. His gaze has changed. But that's not enough to defeat me. Copper Bell Shoes. My artifact Copper Bell Shoes can increase my speed to another level. Let's see if you can catch up now. She dodged again. And her speed is faster than before. She's trying to disrupt my sight. That red woman isn't strong. I shall defeat her first. Sister Jean Ling, he's rushing towards me. If I can defeat one, even if it's one, it's still an advantage. Do you think that I'm easy to be bullied? The weakest fifth rank, my evaluation is indeed correct. You bring shame to those in the same rank as you. What a joke. Do you really think you can protect your junior brother and sister with that level of power? We've never intended for all of you to escape from me. Eldest brother. Eldest brother. If only I was more hardworking, I would be able to help them like Master. I was too lax. I always thought that Master would take care of everything. Junior Sister is so pitiful, she couldn't see this interesting sight of capturing all three M.O. Sec disciples at once. This time, Sister Jean Ling and I achieved something great. I captured them all, it has nothing to do with you. Er, Sister Jean Ling, don't say that. Among these three people, one of them has a deep connection with our tower head. Which one? If it has nothing to do with me, then I'm not interested in saying it either. Since you're not interested, then don't say it. Take them back to the tower overnight. Yes. Sister. Listen to me. That Hei Ting used to be one of the pawns that the tower head strategically placed himself. When he was born, he was designated by the tower head to become a murderous spirit that bears great evil. Carry on. Yes. It was all part of His Excellency's carefully crafted plan. Dear, look at our little Hei Ting. He looks so much like you. Ha ha ha. A guest? Old man, what are you? Darling. You. And you. Little evil spirit, after a few years, we'll meet again. Look at chapter 10. He has evil roots deep within him. In the future, he will definitely be a heinous killer. All of you have to be careful. 
you will cause all of our deaths in the future. He has evil roots. He's not a human. We'll all die by his hands. I don't want to die. Chase him away. He's still so young. If we chase him away, he will definitely die. Let him die. Be resentful. Hate this world. And then, become an evil ghost blade that will massacre this world. Ha 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 ha. Your fate is plagued with misfortune. This is all heaven's will. So to set up his plan, his excellency killed his parents and turned him into a dumb person. Before letting others humiliate and bully him, all to make him hate this world with all his heart. As expected of the heavenly secret tower's tower head. So my parents were all killed by the tower head. I see, everything is all because of him. Bastard. 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 All of you bastards. But how did he become a disciple of M.O. sect and doesn't want to take revenge on the world? Isn't he a seed of evil? I am not sure. I don't know anything about what happened after, and there's no records in the dossier, only the tower head knows the truth. That is naturally because of this venerable one. Who, who is talking? Who is it? Come out now. Our heavenly secret tower is conducting business. Do you want us to become your enemy? I am M.O. Sex Lu Chao G.E. Those who harm my M.O. Sex disciples shall be destroyed. It is M.O. Sex Sect Leader Lu Chao G.E. Quick, shoot him quickly. We captured his disciples. He won't let us go easily. Be careful, Sect Leader. Sect Leader, be careful. From now on, Heavenly Secret Tower is officially at war with my M.O. Sect. In that case, I will show no mercy. Why did all of you? It's his power of water. His power of water has already controlled the blood in our body. Shit. I have to return to the tower. I'll use them as meat shields to delay Lu Chao Ge. Damn it. Sister Jean Ling. Lu Chao Ji, Sect Leader Lu. We, the Heavenly Secret Tower, did not recognize your greatness. Please let us go. He's not killing me? Are you angry? MHM. This will vent your anger. He didn't kill me, which means he's thinking of letting me go. Why don't I? Did I say you can go? Sect Leader Lu. I was just obeying orders. This small one would never have dared to go against M.O. Sect. It was all instigated by the Heavenly Secret Tower's tower head. I want to thank you for telling me about Hei Ting's past, so it turns out that the tower head and I have been connected since the very start. In that case, can you tell me, why did you try to kidnap my M.O. Sect's disciples? To tell you the truth, Heaven's Secret Helper sent us to collect information about M.O. Sect and capture the M.O. Sect disciples. The purpose was to deal with you. Oh, deal with me? His Excellency. Heaven's Secret Helper said that you'd constantly ruined his plans, so he wanted to kill you to satisfy his anger. I ruined his plans? Every move that Heaven's Secret Helper made on behalf of the Heavens, such as Chen Chi's Resurrection, Flying Bird City's Blood Sacrifice Formation, Ice Wolf King's Revival, and H. Hei Ting's Vilification. All these things have been ruined by you. He did all these things? If there is any lie in my words, this little one is willing to be punished. If any of those things weren't stopped, they would have caused a disaster and many people would have died. Yes, that Heaven's Scred Helper has no humanity. He casually kills and beats his subordinates like us too. Do you wish to live? Yes, I want to live. I will do anything. Then return to your Heavenly Secret Tower alive and tell your Tower Master that I will pay him a visit one day. When that time comes, it will be the day Heavenly Secret Tower is destroyed. De-destroyed. I haven't come to see the two of them for a long time, 
I wonder how far have they progressed. The calamity is approaching. I hope they will like the gift I brought them. Ouch. Xiaoqiu, bear with it for a while. After I finish applying the medicine, Senior Sister will treat you to Tom Hulu. Yay! Senior Sister Bing is the best. Ouch. Pain, 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 pain. Seeing how energetic Xiao Qiu is, it looks like she wasn't seriously hurt. What a relief. This happened because I agreed to bring Xiao Qiu down the mountain, otherwise senior brother and junior sister wouldn't have been in danger. It's all because of me. We greet sect leader and master. The two of you still injured, so both of you can sit down. There's no need to stand on ceremony. I'm sure everyone knows the purpose of today's meeting. It's all because I'm useless. I brought shame to Master and M.O. Sect. This disciple is incompetent and brought shame to M.O. Sect. Sect leader, please punish this disciple. Please punish me, Master and Marshal Ant. Everything happened because Xiao Qiu wanted to sneak down the mountain. It has nothing to do with these two senior brothers. Xiao Qiu will take full responsibility. Righteous and awe-inspiring. You were screaming your head off when medicine was applied to your wounds, your righteous words. Really doesn't sound credible at all. Who said that we're going to punish you? No, not punishing us? Then who are you punishing? The people who harmed my M.O. sect disciples, of course. All of you are victims. It's unreasonable to punish you. In the world, when juniors are involved in a conflict with others, the seniors will always punish their own juniors without understanding the truth, but young master is different from them. Since those people at the Heavenly Secret Tower dare to touch my M.O. sex people, I would like to have a little training with them. Since they don't understand reason, I will make them understand through my fists and kicks. Be you but I've heard that there are many disciples in the heavenly secret tower, and that tower head, the heaven's secret helper, is at the almighty sixth rank, while our M.O. sect. Our M.O. sect is weak, and there are only two elders, Master and Marshal Uncle. How are they going to fight them? With Master's nature, she will definitely stop Marshal Uncle. This time, Master supports your Marshal Uncle as well, those who harm my disciples shall be punished. Even Master, who is always grounded, said those words. Sure enough, Master loves us. There's no need to discuss any further. The heavenly secret tower should be destroyed. This venerable one has made up his mind. That heaven's secret helper created the Flying Bird City's blood sacrifice formation, awakened Chin Chi, and recreated the Ice Wolf King. All these are events that greatly increase the progress of the main plot mission. That old thing is definitely a red-named boss. By killing him, the rewards given by the system will definitely be incredibly great, and the main plot mission's progress will probably advance by a huge amount too. Now that you've messed with me, I'll have to destroy you. No. Chow Ge, little Lizzy, don't be rash. Aunt Ning. Aunt Ning, why have you come? We greet Senior Ning. It's fortunate I came at the right timing, that Heaven's Secret Tower is powerful and controls all sorts of information. If you make a move against them, you will end up burning yourself instead. Aunt Ning won't allow you to put yourself in danger. If anything happened to you, how will I explain to your parents? But they did this to our disciples. Aunt Ning shall go too. Aunt Ning. You still haven't told us why you were suddenly free to come here. The calamity is approaching. You should have been burdened with tasks. Oh, I forgot. I did come here in a rush and have to return as soon as possible, but I came specially to give this storage ring to you. Inside this ring are materials for forging artifacts that the sword sect has purchased in large quantities, and Ning left some great ones in there for you. It's good to have someone above you looking after you. Thank you, Aunt Ning. With this, my forging technique will be enhanced to another level. I'll be able to forge equipment for everyone. Everyone will have two sets. Before that, do you agree with what we have discussed just now? What do you think about letting Aunt Ning go with you? 
If I let Aunt Ning go, Aunt Ning might steal my kills. If I don't let her go, I would probably need to expend great efforts to collect these forging materials. Deal. Stealing kills is a small matter. Besides, she's Aunt Ning. It's fine if she steals my kills. You're a sensible kid. If I follow along, Chao Ge will be much safer, and... I want to see just how much he has improved. After Senior Brother Ge returned to the sect, he constantly boasted about Chao Ge and Little Lizzie's progress to me, something about two sword domains, Ancestral Master's sword domain, great cultivator rank, and extraordinary swordsmanship talent. My ears almost had calluses. This time, I can see it with my own eyes. Aunt Ning, if you're going with Brother to Heaven's Secret Tower, what about your tasks at Sword Sect? Before I came, I'd already asked your master to help me for a few days. That junior sister Ning told me to take over for her for a day, and that it's not difficult for her to return from M.O. Sect during that time. But these account books are so boring, buying a batch of refined iron needs my signature. I need to sign for something like this. Whatever, I will just sign it. She will be back in a day anyways. One day passes by so long. Did Lu Chao Ge really say that? Replying to Tower Head, this little one's words are all true. I would never dare to tell lies. That Lu Chao Ge indeed said that he wants to destroy the Heaven's Secret Tower and Sister Jean Ling and Chu Yuan died by his hands. That's fine. Since he's coming, I don't have to go and look for him. We have to meet sooner or later. The tower head is indeed hiding secrets, and that Lu Chao Ge is no match for him. I managed to stay alive. I have to let those two guys calm me down tonight. It has been a while since I saw the two of them. I can finally have fun tonight. His Excellency, have mercy. His Excellency, have mercy. I didn't do anything to betray you. Please spare my life. You should have died with the two of them. There's Lu Chao Ge sent on you, this venerable one. Doesn't like it. No. No. Summon all the Tower Masters for a meeting in the Heaven's Secret Tower. Yes. If he's gathering all the Tower Masters, it means that he's also summoning the Middle Four Tower Masters and the Mysterious Upper Three Tower Masters scattered all over the four continents. How long has it been? Since the Tower Head gathered everyone like this? This time, the Tower Head must be thinking of fighting Lu Chao Ge to death. It's a shame that such a beautiful face is going to fall before I get the chance to enjoy it. Aunt Ning's floating vessel seems to be a new and improved model. It looks so advanced. Hers is like a sports car, while mine is a bicycle. Unlocked after reaching forging proficiency level 3 and above. Damn it, this is just a normal flying artifact, but it requires a proficiency level of 3 to unlock. It's a good thing that Aunt Ning gave forging materials. After I destroy the Heaven's Secret Tower, I will spend some time increasing my forging proficiency. System, how far away is the Heaven's Secret Tower? You've become a great cultivator. Parts of the world map have been unlocked. Based on your current speed, you will reach Heaven's Secret Tower in three days. Three days, I can do many things in that time. System, generate, paper crane, blueprint. The forging blueprint for the yellow grade artifact, Paper Crane, has been generated. Come locked after forging proficiency level I. I can practice by forging the artifacts promised to the players, but it's a shame that I can only forge one type of artifact. I shall increase my forging proficiency first. What is Chao Ge doing? Could it be that he's forging artifacts too? Even I require a smelting and casting artifact to begin forging, but he can forge with just his spiritual energy alone? Chao Ge is indeed gifted in forging artifacts. I must get hold of more materials for him in the future. It's really good to have someone at a higher position looking after you. 3. Aunt Ning, that is the Heaven's Secret Tower. I've never seen it before, so I don't recognize it. 
This is the place, I'm sure of it. Heaven Secret Tower, the real Heaven Secret Tower. Discovered special location, Heaven Secret Tower. Notice, based on the rank of the current host, the danger level is. An instance dungeon with 4 star difficulty, looks like this Heaven Secret Tower is indeed not to be underestimated. But, it's just 4 stars. Hey Ting, stay close. Chao Ge, don't be rash. Don't worry. Aunt Ning, I know not to go overboard. Before this venerable one allows you to act, do nothing. Yes. Look up there. Someone's coming. It's an attack. An enemy attack. Engage them. Fire. Good timing. Slaughter, open. This is perfect for me to stack my LS word of life, buff. This is bad. He's a great cultivator. Do we continue firing? Delay him even if it's a short while. Report the attack quickly. Yes. Our arrows are useless against him. Although I can stack the buffs, this venerable one finds this a little boring. Die trashes. Hey Ting, stay close. Yes. Master. I made a promise with Chao Ge to not take action unless absolutely necessary. After all, I represent Qingzhou's Supreme Sword Sect. If I take action here, it will send a bad message to all the other sects. Besides, from the looks of it, Chao Ge should be able to handle this on his own. Heaven's Secret Helper, come out and die. Master intentionally caused such an uproar on my behalf. I have to learn from Master from now on, I can't be stagnant anymore. Heaven's Secret Helper, come out. You keep sending those trash out, are you trying to act like a coward? I will come out and see you, but now's not the time. You old fossil. Take this. That old fossil can run pretty fast. I almost killed him with that slash. Master's slash was so powerful just now. That is the true strength of a great cultivator. I can't do that at all. What a powerful sword energy. Ordinary 5th rank cultivators might not even be able to take that slash just now. Our little child GE has really grown up. All of you do not have to die for that old thing. Get lost and this venerable one will spare your lives. They can't leave, because our mission is to kill M.O. Sex Sect Leader Hurin. A.N.P. Sisters, Sect Leader Lu is indeed handsome and charming. Tozu Wets. I agree. Deboko. I wonder if Sect Leader Lu is knowledgeable about music. I can play this flute for you a little longer. Heavenly Secret Pavilion, Middle Four Tower Masters. Sister Lu is speaking nonsense again. With his beauty, I have to quickly keep him in the painting scroll for eternity. It's the middle four tower masters. They are all great cultivators. We are saved. That Lu Chao Ge will never win against the four of them together. This is great. Lu Chao Ge is definitely going to lose. These four great cultivators are only in the middle four? Then how strong are the ones at the top? It's a shame that I've only cared about looking at their faces in my previous life. No wonder the system labeled this as 4 stars difficulty. This is indeed worthy of that grading. For 5th ranks, although they are all at the initial stages of 5th rank, they are still at the 5th rank. If they harm a single hair on Chao Ge, I will show them no mercy. Instead of useless words, why not listen to a little tune? Ah, cover your ears. What the hell? This sounds like just because you're so beautiful. That's right, I can mute the sound settings. That way, I won't hear it anymore. Oh, I have to record this too. When I first joined this terrible sect, the Heaven Secret Tower, my friends laughed at me for half a month. But I totally didn't expect that this was all arranged by fate. Start recording. An exclusive view at Lu Chao Ge destroying a sect.
The spiritual energy in my body was stirred into chaos by the sound of the lute. It feels so bad. As expected of Master, he wasn't affected at all. However, the truth is that Lu Chao Ge experienced something different from the rest. The sound of the lute can make others hallucinate. Little brother, come and play with us. You must be tired. Come and take a break. Sister Lu Zhao's lute can stir the spiritual energy of the weak into chaos and disrupt the mental state of the strong. It can even affect you, Lu Chao Ge. I, Hong Shan, shall take your life. Oh no! I can't let them harm Master. As expected of Master, he cut through the sound of the lute and the wind blade in one slash. How did he, isn't he? Do you think this venerable one will be affected by such lowly trash? Seriously, who do you think I am? You sent three wind blades toward me. Let me send you a slash in return. Junior Sister Hong Shan. Senior Sister Hong. Lu Chao Ji. I will take revenge for Senior Sister Hong. Hurry, provide cover for Junior Sister Huang Hua. Yes. I refuse to believe that blowing the flute at full force can't disrupt the mental state of a fifth rank like you. Mm -hmm. What's going on? My mouth seems to be stuck together by something like a rice cake. My tongue is so heavy too. I can't move it at all. Since you like blowing the flute so much, I will stick it on you. It's his power of heaven and earth. Humph. Looking elsewhere? Don't be too arrogant. My technique is unique. As long as you enter my painting scroll, you'll be under my control. Lu Chao Ge, you shall suffer torment within my painting. I will play with your beautiful face till I'm bored of it before killing you. Hey Ting, I will let you handle this kind of trash. I have to let my disciple gain battle experience occasionally. After all, the rewards from the master disciple system are very generous. Yes, master. Well, what is that sword technique? Whatever, I will absorb them all into the painting first. No, there's something wrong with this sword energy. These guys aren't illusions created by spiritual energy. They are actually real ghosts. My painting, it's going to explode. This is an artifact that is bound to my life. If this explodes, then I... Why? What are all those glowing things? Those must be the pitiful beings captured in the painting. They are able to go back home now. You saved them. You are their hero. I am a hero. You are the last one left, so what other tricks do you have? Of course, even if you don't have any moves left, I will still beat the shit out of you. Lu Chao Ge, you indeed live up to your great reputation. Should I escape? But, we've all seen what the tower head would do to us. If we escape now, we would definitely die. Since sect leader Lu is interested, Lan Pai will naturally accompany you to the end. But as the leader of the middle four tower masters of the Heaven Secret Tower, there is a big difference between me and my other sisters. Nidhal Serene Sound of Loot I am a true great cultivator that possesses a domain. Not only has Chao Ge become stronger, but Hei Ting has also reached the realm of a great cultivator. I can't believe that the little M.O. sect has at least three great cultivators. That's right, little Lizzie is highly regarded in Ant Ning's heart. Even though not even Ji Chang Kong knows what rank his disciple is at. Looks like we seniors have really become old in the end. Senior brother Ji, Chao Ji E is indeed as impressive as you've mentioned. Don't stop me, I only agreed to take over Ning Ying for a day. Marshal Uncle Ji. Marshal Aunt Ning isn't here so you have to handle all her sect matters. Otherwise, everything will be in a mess. I didn't expect to be tricked by a woman like you in my old age when I've been wise all my life. 
This next tune shall be your elegy. Sect Leader Lu, goodbye. Ah. Someone was sliced into pieces. What's going on? That sound of the loot is strange. I can't let it hurt master. But why is there no pattern to this kind of slashes? If I don't see through this technique quickly, it will become very troublesome. I see. Hey Ting, stand aside. I've already seen through her domain. Eh? Master saw through it that quickly? What's going on? Stand aside quickly. Your master alone is enough. This domain is very strange. How is Chao Ge going to deal with it? Humph. Arrogant. You are clearly just bluffing. The power of your domain is to transform the sounds from your loot into sword energy or something sharp. My guess should be correct. How do you know? Oh no. As expected, it is what I've thought. I got my answer just by asking casually. So what if you know, even the tower head can't handle my domain? After all, even I don't know where the next slash will go. As long as the sound of the loot is sufficient, you, who are in my domain, will be sliced sooner or later. Those are completely unpredictable slashes. Is that so? After I leveled up my harmony of heaven and earth, I've become somewhat adept at manipulating water in special ways. Her domain is a fifth rank domain after all, it is flawed. And this flaw is that when the loot sounds are transformed into slashes, it happens gradually and not immediately. I realized this from that slash at Hating. Everything which changes gradually cannot escape the perception of water, because water is the most sensitive. Sure enough, before the slash is formed, the water will form bubbles first. What's going on? How did he sense the changes in the sounds of the loot? Your domain has become ineffective. You even killed your own people. You've done many terrible things. Furthermore, although my disciple isn't as handsome as me, I would get angry too if you scar his face. No. 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 This is what you deserve. All that's left is you. Are you going to resist till the end, or are you going to listen to me and bring me to your tower head? Sick Leader Lu, you won't be easily discovered by the tower head if you use this small passageway. Master, I think that this woman is not trustworthy. Putting aside whether she is trustworthy or not, having her as a hostage can save us the trouble of having small fries block our path. HM? A mail notification. There is a new hot post on the MO sect forum page that you are following. Come and take a look. What a good guy. So now the system knows how to do advertisements. Newest first hand video about Mr. Liu. One man versus three women. I barely managed to record this. Please like and share. Thank you. Didn't this just happen? It went viral so quickly. Ah. My husband. Where is Lu Chao Ge at? Why is he killing a bunch of hot chicks? What the hell? These chicks are too vicious. They slice the people into pieces. This is ridiculous. Who are those guys? Why did Lu Chao Ge go there? Lu Chao Ge came to my heaven secret tower to destroy my sect. Apparently, it was a grudge that has festered for a long time, and the tower head of heaven secret tower wanted to kill Lu Chao Ge too. If you want to see the latest video of Lu Chao Ge annihilating the sect, remember to follow me. To think that there are players who joined a villainous sect like Heaven Secret Tower. The level of freedom in Tianxian world is indeed very high. There's even a human-sized recorder in a dungeon. Sect Leader Lu, that is the location of the tower head, if we go any further. The tower head will know that I was the one who guided you. It's indeed a secret passageway. She's worried that she will be killed for betraying Heaven's secret helper. 
It seems like she believes that Heaven's Secret Helper has a higher chance of winning. Continue leading the way, since this venerable one is here, that Heaven's Secret Helper will not be alive when this is over. Yes. This Lu Chao GE is clearly only at the level of Great Cultivator, but why is the pressure he is exerting equal to the Tower Head? He will definitely not let me go, and the Tower Head will also not forgive me, there is no way out for me. But this kind of feeling is a torment, it's better to end this quickly. As long as I hit his heart, he will definitely die even if it's Lu Chao GE. Die. Looks like you chose the tower head in the end. You killed my sisters, why would I ever help you? At the very least, we die together. Was it really because of your sisterhood? Or was it a final struggle to save yourself? If you help me, you die. If you don't, you die too. But in your mind, it's easier to kill me than to kill Heaven's secret helper, am I right? So what if you are? So what if you aren't? At the end of the day, Aren't the lives of us weaklings in the hands of the strong like you? That's right, weren't you the ones who controlled the lives of the weak? I've already investigated and found out that the four middle tower masters of the Heavenly Secrets Pavilion committed many murders in all the four great continents. All of you are not as beautiful as what your appearances may suggest. Rongyu City, an entire city of lives, was lost by the hands of the four of you, all because you wanted to have some fun. Yenna Village, an entire village of lives, was sacrificed just to prove that the sound of your flute can shatter internal organs. Was I wrong? We hid the truth thoroughly and everyone thought that the demonic cultivators did it, so how did you find out? I didn't know at first. In my previous life, the destruction of the Heaven's Secret Tower happened during the Calamity. They turned against us and assisted the demonic beasts that surged out of the Eye of Chaos, slaughtering countless cultivators. This eventually infuriated the Sword Sovereign, who personally destroyed the sect with his thunderous wrath. And when the Heaven's Secret Tower collapsed, many hidden secrets were revealed. I was just a Chuenchio Mountain disciple at that time and didn't really care much about it at all, only glancing at it casually. After all, everything then was just part of a game plot, and these lives are nothing more than numbers. But right now, they are no longer numbers nor code. In this world, they are living humans. Let's go, Hei Ting. Lu Chao Ji. Explain yourself clearly. How did you find out? Let me go. I've already told you. You get what you deserve. Should we knock? Master. Knock my ass. Heaven's secret helper, this venerable one has come to take your life. Come out here and die. Why is no one coming? Don't tell me that I've scared everyone off. Master, that woman mentioned before that we walked up a rare small road. So there should be no one guarding this place. Since no one is coming, Climbing the tower to grab that old thing is fine by me too. Let's go. Yes. This heaven's secret tower has existed for thousands of years. Countless secrets are collected here. It would be a great pity if this pavilion is destroyed after killing heaven's secret helper. But that would depend on whether there are any sensible people in this place. Master, there's an array. We can't fly through it. All we have to do is break it then. Sect Leader Lu, this array contains the power of the Heavenly Tao. Even a 6th or 7th rank Almighty Cultivator would suffer backlash for attempting to break the array. I will advise you from doing so. After all, at best, you would lose a great deal of your power, and at worst, you will die immediately. Who's there? My name is Yubai one of the Heaven Secret Tower's three Upper Tower Masters. One of the three Tower Masters view ball. I control all the information relating to mortals one collected over the past thousand years. Do you also want to sacrifice your life for Heaven Secret Thelper? You buy, this is a rather new name. Before the collapse of the tower in my previous life, I've never heard of this name. 
She's a very mysterious woman and forms the fighting force of Heavenly Secrets Pavilion second only to Heaven's Secret Tower together with two other three Upper Tower Masters. Furthermore, this woman is a great cultivator already at the peak of fifth rank and could break through to the sixth at any moment. We three sisters have been oppressed by Heaven's Secret Helper for a long time, so naturally we are not as stupid as our other sisters. Heaven's Secret Tower has an unpredictable temper and would beat and scold us at any time. He even sealed our cultivation and left us to be toyed by dirty and filthy people. I want to kill him and have no intention of helping him. You are a three upper tower master and a higher up of the Heaven's Secret Tower. Even so, that Heaven's Secret Helper did such a vile thing to you? Three upper tower masters? That's just a false title to fool others. The twelve tower masters of the Heaven's Secret Tower are just toys for Heaven's Secret Helper. He has never treated us as humans. He toys with us whenever he is bored and sends us to our deaths when he needs us to. It's a pity that our other sisters can't see the truth and think that Heaven's Secret Helper is treating them with sincerity. How pathetic and laughable. Who are you? I am Yin Ji, and I am also one of the three upper tower masters of Heaven's Secret Tower. I am in charge of all information relating to artifacts collected by Heaven's Secret Tower over the past 1,000 years. One of the three upper tower masters, Yin. We have one more sister. Please let us bring her out to meet you. I am Hu Pu. Hu Pu. One of the three upper tower masters, Hu Pu. W. H. Watt, a nice looking face. So sorry. This venerable one has an appearance that defies the heavens. You don't have to apologize for how I look. Yes. My name is Hu Pu, and I am in charge of all related information regarding beasts, and I'm also one of the three upper tower masters. Since all three upper tower masters are here, tell me why you've come. Should we say it? But are you certain that this Lu Chao Ge will win? If Lu Chao Ge loses, all three of us will definitely die. W we want to help you. Why did this girl say it out loud? Oh? Be you but if Heaven's Secret Helper finds out, we will all be executed. So, we want to know one thing. Can you really defeat Heaven's Secret Helper? Since this venerable one is present, he will surely die. The three upper tower masters have surrendered. Perhaps this is the best chance for me to keep the Heaven's Secret Tower for my use. Since Hupa has already said this much, there is no turning back. I have to say a few words to leave a good impression on Sect Leader Lu. All right, in that case the three of us will help Sect Leader Lu break this array. Senior Sister Yu Bai. Junior Sister Hu Pu has already said her piece. If I don't do anything, Sect Leader Lu will think that I'm indecisive. That's right. If Sect Leader Lu can really kill the old guy, the three of U.S. will seek to join M.O. Sect. There is no need. Does Sect Leader Lu think that we are dirty? I need you to help me continue managing the Heaven Secrets Tower. The three of you don't need to be Tower Master anymore. You can be the Tower Heads. We really? This venerable one does not lie. Fine, sisters, let us help Sect Leader break this array. Yes. When Heaven's Secret Helper designed this array, he balanced it by making it necessary for the three of us to combine our powers to break this array. But it requires the three of us to be of the same heart and mind, which is extremely difficult to do, so he called this array, Seamless Heavenly Robe. However, he is a vile person and never treats us as human beings. Now it is the time for us to break this heavenly robe. PL please, you must win. Master, the array has been broken. We can continue to move forward. Let's save the three of them first. As long as Sect Leader Lu kills Heaven's Secret Helper, sustaining such a heavy injury is worth it. But I'm afraid that I'm walking out of the wolf's den and into the tiger's lair. 
If MOSEC Lu Chao GE is the same type of person as Heaven's Secret Helper, what will become of me and my sisters? Eh. Everyone. Seeing that all of you have decided to support MO Sect, you will be under my care. MO Sect Sect Leader. Perhaps we have really made the right choice. At the very least, he's better looking than that old guy. All of you hide here for a while and bring those still alive in the Heaven Secrets Tower to our side. Yes. Sect Leader. Hey Ting, today, Master will teach you another lesson. If you want to win over hearts, you must first use your own. Yes. The formation is complete. As long as you are revived, then everything I did will be meaningful. As long as you awaken, that Lu Chao GE will definitely die. He's finally going to awaken. To win over the hearts of others, you must first use your own. My little Chao GE, when did you possess the aura of a leader? Perhaps in this calamity, Chao GE is really able to turn the tides for Tian Qian. We are almost at the top. Hey Ting, be careful. MHM. Heaven's secret helper, this venerable one has come to take your dog life. What is that formation? Master, I sense the presence of a soul jade. Soul jade? Lu Chao Ji, you indeed came. What, are you going to say, that all this is part of your predictions again? He he, it's not my predictions. It's the Heavenly Tao. You coming here is all part of the guidance of Heavenly Tao. After all, the game of chess I'm playing on behalf of the heavens has already ended. And just now, was my final move. You spew too much nonsense, this venerable one doesn't like it. Right now, it's my turn to become a chess piece and kill the bastard that keeps ruining my game. Do you see this? This is all the power of Heavenly Tao. Slowed sound normal. It's no use. I'm enhanced with the power of Heavenly Tao. The world I see is the future. I know the location of all your slashes, and I know what techniques you will use. There's no way for you to win. Cease your useless struggles. Lu Chao Ji. Human Immortal. Spirit Slash. That is the power of Heavenly Tao, and not spiritual energy. Your sword domain can only absorb the latter. I've investigated everything thoroughly. Ho oh, how is this possible? This is the power of Heavenly Tao, but why is it easier to absorb than spiritual energy? You've absorbed 0.1% of the Heavenly Tao power. For every 10% of it absorbed, you will receive a secret reward. Note, after absorbing 100% of Heavenly Tao power, the secret treasure reward will be unlocked. Absorbing this thing gives me a secret reward? And there's even a secret treasure reward at 100%. Nice, nice, nice. There is now another new way for this old thing to die. I shall suck him dry before he's dead. Heaven's secret helper, die. I don't believe that your body can contain all the power of Heavenly Tao within me. You've absorbed 0.2% of Heavenly Tao power. You've absorbed 0.3% of Heavenly Dad power. You've absorbed 0.5% of Heavenly Tao power. I haven't even exerted myself yet. Why have you collapsed? Ho, oh, how did you? How? Impossible. Is there really no heavenly Tao power left in you? Get up and let this venerable one suck more. You. My name has been known throughout the world for a thousand years. How can I lose to a nameless pawn like you? So what if I'm not human anymore? King Liu. Lu Chao Ji. I want you to die. Pleasantly surprised. Oh, 
there's still a second phase. Will there be more heavenly Tao power for me to absorb? You shall be the first person I eat raw. Hey Ting, stay further away. Otherwise, you will be splatter ed with the juices of the stink bug and your clothes will stink. Yes. Then we shall see who exactly is the real stink bug. Are we fighting close quarters? This suits my intentions. Master is so powerful. My eyes can't catch up to their speed. Hey Ting, look carefully. This old guy is the liar who decided that you would destroy the world. Remember this well, you are not a calamity. You are the Tianqian world's chosen one's disciple and will be one of the heroes who will save the world from the calamity in the future. Master, what's going on? Why has your speed become faster? I was able to match your speed at the beginning. It's not that I've become faster, but that you've become slower. Every time I slash you, a bit of water enters your body, and all the water between heaven and earth is under my control. So what? Your strikes can't even break my defenses, I can still kill you. Is that so? Slowed sound, final form. Sound form, ink dragon. This venerable one one. The maxed stacks of the Sword of Life buff, coupled with the inherent critical strike effects of slowed sound, and in addition to the 500% damage increase in the final form, even if you're in the seventh realm, this slash will still kill you. You've killed an important character, Heaven's Secret Helper. Qing Zhou main plot mission, King Hades' sword, progress has been increased to 31.8%. Initial progress was at 21.8%. The rewards for this kill will be accumulated to the rewards of the next phase of the main plot mission and will be triggered additionally. To think that killing Heaven's Secret Helper will directly increase the main plot mission by 10%. This guy is indeed a major boss. But the players really aren't doing much. It has been a while and the main plot mission didn't increase by much at all. You've killed TNG Sanren, EXP received, 20 million. You've killed Tower Master Lan Pai, EXP received, 7 million. You've killed Tower Master Hong Shan, EXP received, 5 million. You've killed Tower Master Lu Xiao, EXP received, 4.5 million. So the rewards for killing those bosses with red names will only be issued after killing Heaven's Secret Helper. It's a pity that some was given to Hei Ting, otherwise, the rewards will be more. He <laughs> he. Lu Chao Ji. Did you think that you've won? Are you a cockroach? Why are you still not dead? The real sword of Hades has been awakened. I may have died, but you won't live long either. Ha ha ha. What is the real sword of Hades? Ha 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 ha. Dead? He died after speaking halfway? Are you a Riddler? Get the hell away from here. The real sword of Hades, huh? There's still 70% left in the main plot mission progress and is not completed yet. I remember that the final boss of the Qingzhou main plot mission is. Lord Sect Leader, please save us. It's Yuebai's voice, they're in trouble down there. But the strongest of the Heaven's Secret Tower, their tower head, has died. What else is there that can threaten the lives of the three Tower Masters? What else is Heaven's Secret Helper hiding? Master, prepare to follow. It's easy for you to suffer collateral damage in the following battle, so just stay where you are. Even Senior Ning felt that it would be troublesome? Thank you Senior Ning for your concern, but even if I get injured accidentally, I have to help Master. There's no need for you to go, this time, I shall lend a hand. Senior Ning is going to assist. The spiritual energy fluctuations of the sound transmission came from the big lake over there. 
They are over there. That is. It's you, Abba. You, Abba, what's going on? Lord Sect Leader. You are finally here. After we parted with you, we originally wanted to bring in those people who escaped from the Heavenly Secrets Tower and get them to work for you, but... We suddenly sensed that there was a strong ghost and death aura coming from this lake. So we thought of coming here to investigate first. But a dark shadow suddenly ambushed me. Hu Pu and Yin Ji are fighting the Black Shadow now, Lord Sect Leader. Please hurry over and take a look. I will go right now. Black Shadow, what kind of Black Shadow can bring down one of the three Upper Tower Masters in one strike? The three Upper Tower Masters are all great cultivators approaching the sixth rank. All right, Sect Leader. Where is Heaven's Secret Helper? This Venerable One killed him. You finally received your retribution. I can finally sense their spiritual energy with my divine senses, who puff and yin jis upon it. Is the seventh rank almighty? Get out of the way. Sword sect uniform. And a sect leaders at that. Who is that person? Sword cultivator? Sword cultivators should die. Sect leader. Hurry and get away. Humph. What a massive strength. System, analyze. Let's see who are you. Ning Jianshan, current level, 72. Previous sword sex sect leader. Difficulty level. The highest at 5 inch. His surname is Ning, and he's the previous sword sect leader. What is this coincidence? Father? This old man is Aunt Ning's father. Father, why are you here? Didn't. You pass away 30 years ago? Ning Jianshan is really Ant Ning's father, and he had already passed away decades ago. It looks like the last King Hades sword that Heaven's Secret Helper awakened is him. The real King Hades sword has been awakened. I may have died, but you won't live long either. Ha 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 ha. It's a shame that in my previous life, as a spear cultivator in Chuenchio Mountain, I did not thoroughly go and understand who the ultimate bosses of Beizhou are. I only remember that one of them was an extremely terrifying fire attribute sword cultivator. The terrifying level 83 boss at that time turns out to be Ant Ning's father. The good thing is that he has just awakened and has yet to recover his full strength. I can still deal with him at his current state. Ugh. Daughter. Ugh. Father. Aunt Ning, don't go over. He's no longer your father. I know, but how did he get revived? Do you remember the Chen Chi episode? Chen Chi had also died long ago, but he was also revived. It's the power of the soul jade, the death and ghostly energy of King Hades awakened them. So it's the soul jade. Does that mean that he has become a murdering tool for other people? My head hurts so much, ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Father, do you really not recognize me? Father, wake up and stop your bloodlust. Kill. 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 Aunt Ning, leave this to me. But, so heavy, is this the power of a seventh rank? Father, wake up, it's me, it's Ning Ying. This is bad, he changed tactics so quickly, Aunt Ning, move away quickly. As expected, you are exactly the same as before. You bastard old man. That is your daughter. Hey. Daughter. Such powerful strength. His speed is so fast. 
Damn it. This guy's abilities are even stronger than Hang Ying who can suppress cultivation ranks. Furthermore, he has killing intent and his actions are even sharper. Ant Ning. Sorry, Chao Ji, I lost control of my emotions just now. Even if you are my father, I can't let you harm him in front of me. Boring. Father had already reached the 8th rank before he left. Although he only has the power of a 7th rank right now, his strikes are still heavy. Can I really defeat my father? My father was a person who once stood at the peak of the sword sect. He's the only divine sword who can stand together with the previous sword sovereign. At Ning, don't get distracted. Even if he's your real father, we should send him off so that he can rest in peace. Yes, we must let him rest in peace. If he knew that he had become an evil tool for murder after his death, he wouldn't be able to rest peacefully in his grave. Ha! Chao Ji, Aunt Ning needs your help with something. What is it? Let me handle the matter of letting my father rest in peace alone. This is my family business. But, but this guy is King Hades' sword. If I kill him, I will be able to get tons of system rewards. Besides, his rank might be unstable, but it's still higher than Aunt Ning's. Aunt Ning will be in danger. I know you are worried about me, but... Please, let me have my way this time. If Aunt Ning is in any mortal danger, I will definitely lend a hand. All right, thank you, Chao Ji. Before Aunt Ning is in any danger, I must control myself and not join the fight. While Aunt Ning is fighting him, I will save the two of them first. Father's sword energy is as ferocious as before, filled with dominance. I really miss this feeling. But, I'm no longer the girl that only knows how to cry. These are the strongest artifacts that I've forged. Windflower and Snow Moon. Father, I will prove myself to you. Go. I will prove that women can also defeat men. What's the point of slashing so far away? Father, many years have passed and I've become the strongest artifact forger in the sword sect. My battle style is different from other sword cultivators. Artifact Myriad Windflower Blades My Plaid Windflower Blades I've suppressed him. Now, I just need to crush him completely. Goodbye, Father. Windflower shaped. So Ant Ning is that powerful, as expected of the strongest forging master in the sword sect. This kind of attack won't pierce my body. Ant Ning. Be careful. This sword energy has been compressed to its maximum. If Aunt Ning got hit, she would either die or suffer major injuries. Don't need to come over, Chao Ji. Aunt Ning? Th this is also one of Aunt Ning's artifacts? Wow, that is massive and is also of the rare ice attribute. Is this thing a purple grade artifact? This is my second top artifact is now Moon. It's controlled with my sword just like Windflower. Windflower, for offense, and Snow Moon, for defense, they are my strongest artifacts. Together, they are called Windflower and the Snow Moon. It's no use hiding in water. I've recovered, I can use that move. Domained Fire God. TH this is. Domain. Fire. God. This is Father's Sword Domain, Fire God.
Father's domain is a special sword domain that allows him to resonate with his fire attribute. It can expand out wards indefinitely and amplify his sword moves. If I ignore his domain, it will destroy everything around us sooner or later. That is Ant Ning's father's domain? It looks like it's a special sword domain which allows him to be in harmony with the heaven and earth attribute. I can't control the flying flower seed to attack when in defense form. Now that it has come to this, I have to open my own sword domain. But, my domain has to envelop him to be useful. I can't reach him at this distance. I can only ignore everything and get close to him first. Courting death. This distance is close enough. I domain dark heaven. Domain heaven. That is Ant Ning's sword domain. This is my first time seeing it. Ant Ning doesn't want me to help, but getting closer to observe Ant Ning's domain should be fine, right? What is this domain? My flames are disappearing and I can't see anything. Even my divine sense doesn't work. Father, before you died, you didn't even know what my sword domain was. Today, I finally have the chance to show it to you. There's sound coming from everywhere. Where are you hiding? Those who step into my dark heaven will have their domain, heaven and earth attribute, senses and divine senses sealed. Their listening will be disrupted too. This domain has a massive sealing effect, but the price is that I'll be sealed along with it. Only sword techniques and artifacts will determine who wins. This is definitely a domain that gives me full advantage. Before my vision is lost, he is in that location. This domain is so peculiar, I must escape its range first. He wants to escape my domain. Do you want to flee from this sword domain? Your vision will never be restored before I kill you. What did you say? My black heaven is actually a cursed seal. The targets cursed by me will experience the same curse effect as me. How amusing, father. This is the first time I've felt the same as you, right? Boring. Your artifact cannot kill me, but I can kill you. As long as my sword aura cuts you once, you will undoubtedly die. There is no one who cannot be killed, father, just as you said. I can win too. Hmm. Junior brother G is bullying people. Bullying people. It's clearly senior sister Ning being too weak, okay? Ha ha ha. Stop crying all the time. You can win too. You can't disgrace your father. Remember, you are the daughter of Ning Sword Mountain. Father, this time. I will definitely win. Senior brother Jinzuwen said that when facing someone resurrected by the soul jade, they will undoubtedly die once the soul jade is extracted. But the condition is, his soul jade must have dropped, and I haven't been killed by his sword aura. Is that sound? The soul jade? What's going on? Didn't I already release the soul jade? That. That's. So many soul jades. Senior brother Jinzuin, it turns out that those resurrected by the soul jade might possess more than one soul jade. Farewell, my useless daughter. You indeed. Still remember me. Regard me as a disgrace. Just at the second realm. You're already 27 years old and only at the second realm. Are you worthy of being my daughter? Get out. Your mother died giving birth to you, and yet you turned out to be a waste. Do you think you're worthy of her sacrifice? That's right, in fact. My father didn't like me at all. Guards, 
expel her from the sword sect. Because I disgraced him, I can't become a powerful sword cultivator. I have no interest in the path of the sword. I only enjoy crafting. I beg the sect master to give senior sister Ning another chance. I beg the sect master to give her another chance. Sec master, please think carefully. Since all of you dare to defy me, then I will person ally kill this woman who has brought shame upon Ning Sword Mountain. If she were a man, it wouldn't have been like this. And besides, he also dislikes that I am a woman. From beginning to end, he has despised me. Last time, he didn't kill me, but this time, he will finally succeed. Trash like you doesn't deserve the Ning surname. Aunt Ning, why do I feel that something is off about this father of yours? It's all the grudges of the previous generation. It has nothing to do with you as the younger generation. But I'm curious to know, since a while ago, has my spiritual power been continuously drained? Because once my human immortal is activated, it indiscriminately absorbs the spiritual power of all things. Human immortal. Ethereal spirit. A peculiar domain. But it's just child's play. Save her? You all will die doing meaningless foolish things. Hurry and leave. He is not an opponent we can handle. Quickly return to the sword sect. It's best to have the four great divine swords take action. Aunt Ning, in addition to my soul theft, and Soul Sever, my domain has another special effect. I can defeat him. I have a 50% chance. 50%? You must not take such a risk. Hmm. I asked him to wait at the tower. He. Master, I'm here. When did he arrive? I didn't even notice. Take Master Ning to a safe place and wait there. Yes. Don't force yourself. Don't worry, Aunt Ning. With me, 50% is equivalent to 100%. 50% equals 100%? Ah. You still have some morals, not taking advantage of the opportunity to ambush. I shall grant you a thrilling battle. You will all die. It's just a matter of dying sooner or later. That's not necessarily true, but I'm curious. Over the millennia. With numerous sect masters falling in the sword sect, why did the Hermit of Heavenly Secrets choose you for resurrection? Go ask him in the depths of the underworld, and you will know. Domain, slaughter, the domain of the ancestor, unexpectedly awakened in someone like you, an outsider. You shall be punished. Then come and give it a try. Galaxy Active Life Sword Unleash Sword Domain Slaughter Effect Each time Life Sword is unleashed, damage increases by 1%. Stacks up to 50 times. Note The Divine Arm of Fire disappears when Lu Chauga engages in close combat, belonging to the Divine Arm's Adi attack mode. Wow, I can't see their movements at all. Brothers, remember to slow down the live stream video by tens of times. Maybe then we can see. Live stream viewers, 100,000. Damn, can't see anything clearly. Even though I can't see, he looks so cool. He truly deserves to be my husband. Who dares to challenge my husband in a sword fight? So daring. If they scratch my husband's face, I'll kill them. Bullshit. Is this the Heavenly Secrets Pavilion? How can such a crappy sect allow players to join? Brothers. Slow it down by 34 times, and you'll be able to see sect leader Lou for sure. Tested and proven. Activate the rain effect, and you can see the screen raining. Damn. Lu Chauga is up to tricks again. Impressive. Where did this person even get this? What is it? Can it delay time? Livestream viewers, 100000. 
Damn. What a great angle. I'm already licking my screen. I'm licking. I'm licking. I've licked it twice, bro. I lick. I lick. I lick. The Master Lu actually went to exterminate the Heavenly Secrets Pavilion. It seems that the previous generation's sect master of the sword sect is nothing special. Unfortunately, I am no longer alive. Your sword skills are exquisite. Who exactly are you? Bearing the ancestral sword domain of the sword sect and using the secret sword technique passed down in my sword sect. Whose disciple are you? G, right? Senior G is indeed impressive, but he is already my sister's master. Listen carefully to my master's name, I will only say it once. My master's name is Lu Qingfeng. He is my father. Remember this well. We sword cultivators wield our swords to rectify the injustices of this world, to protect the weak and vulnerable. He is the best master in this world. Never heard of it. What kind of riffraff are you? You have become stronger? No, it's my human immortal that has ascended. The realm of human immortal. Ascending to immortality. I activated human immortal when you were fighting Ant Ning precisely for this moment. Its ultimate effect is difficult to trigger. I will make you pay the price for defaming my master. Domain human immortal. Effect. When the accumulation of spiritual power reaches 200% of oneself, this state can be triggered, granting a 50% increase in all attributes. Oh. My God. A domain similar to my fire gods. No, how does he possess both the ancestral skill of killing and this peculiar domain? What exactly? Are you? This is the third effect of the human immortal. System prompt? Open it. Congratulations, you have successfully triggered the domain. The third effect of the human immortal has unlocked the domain for you. The ultimate effect of the human immortal. After ascending to immortality, there are hidden effects. Indeed, the human immortal is even more powerful than I imagined. Truly worthy of an orange grade domain. In your current state, I must admit that I recognize you as a worthy opponent. The Qingzhou sword path has been silent for a long time. With talents like you, except for that scholar boy, there should be no one who can rival you. I don't need your recognition. I only need your head. If you want my head, you are welcome to come and take it yourself. Considering you as an opponent is merely to let you see the true face of the fire god. The true face of the fire god. That. That is. The phenomenon that only occurs when my father activates the second effect of the fire god. Does that mean my master is in danger? Not necessarily. Only when he encounters an opponent he acknowledges will he fully unleash the fire god and use its second effect. This indicates that Chaoga has become powerful enough to earn my father's recognition. I really don't know whether to cry or laugh. I have been practicing diligently for decades, but have yet to earn my father's recognition, while Chaoga, at such a young age, has already surpassed me. That strange child has finally grown into a towering man. The Ultimate Form of the Great God Unfortunately, the body strength restored by the soul jade is far inferior to my former self. It can't withstand the power of the fire god at all. Fortunately, it can continuously regenerate, but this fire god's fissy cow form is only a little over 10 meters tall, unable to recreate the brilliance of my past. Brothers, I'm at a loss. You guys take a look for yourselves. If I work hard in my cultivation, can I also become like this? That's the new skill that can be unlocked by completing the advancement task at level 50 in the celestial realm. So, so cool. If I reach level 50 in my training, 
Can I also become like this? I can't hold it anymore. I need to log in. I'm done with this damn class today. I'm going to cultivate immortality. Quick. Hurry home. Log in. Hmm. Today's battle between Lu Chaoga and me has ignited the passion of countless players. This appearance is only suitable to be my opponent. A 50% increase in all attributes. I'm feeling a bit overwhelmed by my own speed for a moment. It's even faster than expected. But fortunately, my defense has also increased by 50%. With defense as a foundation, adapting to the changes in speed and strength won't be a problem. Is that Chaoga's new technique? I have never seen Master like this. No wonder the Sek Master was able to kill the notorious Heavenly Secrets villain. He is truly as formidable as the rumors say. Every time my sword clashes with him, not a single strike manages to injure him. The fire god shouldn't be this weak. Moreover, his domain is constantly draining my spiritual power, even with the soul jade supplement. If this continues, I will undoubtedly lose. The spiritual power transformed from a soul jade is being completely absorbed by him. Now I finally understand why killing is only worthy of being a purple grade skill, while human immortal is orange grade. The effect of human immortal's soul sever can continuously extract the spiritual power of the current target. And soul theft can constantly draw spiritual power from everything within a one mile radius. Unlimited mana. And ascending to immortality can strengthen my abilities. Conclusion, this is simply a perpetual motion machine. Even if the enemy doesn't die, they will be drained dry. I have been fighting until now without using a drop of my own mana. So, how do you break this situation? You are already destined to lose. I have fallen into an inevitable defeat, but... Every Qingzhou sword cultivator has a fatal weakness. As long as I seize that weakness, there is still a chance for me to turn the tables. Even at this point, he's still trying to fight me head on. He's desperate. Hmm? Such great strength. Is he trying to make a last-ditch effort? We can't let our guard down. The power of the Fire God is indeed formidable. After all, it's a level 72 boss. But he won't last much longer either. At the end of his strength, I will now take your dogs. Running away? Don't even think about escaping. TNG City. Hot and sour noodles. We have everything you need. Boss, two bowls of wonton noodles, extra spicy. What? What is happening? TH this. Quick, look up at the sky. What are you going to do? He was once the Grandmaster of the Sword Sect. He wouldn't do something like that, would he? The only weakness of Sword Cultivator is their sense of responsibility to save the world. W. What is that? Is it? Is it going to destroy the entire city? Such a massive fire figure. Quick, run. Why are you just standing there? He actually. But I have long since lost that weakness. Help! Help us! Run! Run! It's over! We're finished! Mom! T, that's a cultivator! A cultivator has come to save us! We're saved! We're saved! Quick, count out to the cultivator! Are you still the former Grandmaster of the Sword Sect? Why would you attack ordinary people? It's useless. I have completely overcome that weakness on the day I died. Dad. Dad. Was my life worth it? 
What benefit do I gain from ending up like this, just to get rid of those two demonic cultivators who bring calamity to the world? Is it for the sake of making them weep and mourn at my grave? Why should I save those ordinary people? I've dedicated my life to sword cultivation. Why should I sacrifice my life for those ordinary people who are content with mediocrity and lack ambition? The bloodline of my Ning family has not been passed down, and I haven't found a true successor. And yet I'm about to die like this. I refuse to accept it. I refuse to accept it. Father. Grand Master. Grand Master. Grand Master. I refuse to accept it. If only I could start over. I would live only for myself. Is it worth it to defend these mediocre and idle ordinary people? You can't retaliate against me for the sake of protecting them. Is it worth it? What is there to consider worth or not worth? I am willing. Do you understand what it means to be a deity? It means having control over the life and death of mortals. That is what it means to be a god. Th this. That. That thing has grown even larger. Cultivator. Then let me show you that you cannot save anyone. All of you inferior humans shall become ashes. Should I act? There's no hurry, since the Sword Sovereign and Saintus view him to be the future of Tian Qian, this old monk thinks that we can continue watching and see how he will handle it. As the pillar of Tian Chuan's future, that's not his full power. That's reasonable. He actually used such a despicable method, I finally understand why Heaven's secret helper chose to revive this sword sex sect leader. Because, he's a total bastard. A bastard who is not worthy of the title of a sword cultivator. Kid, are you insulting this venerable one? No, this venerable one wasn't insulting you, Using bastard to describe you is merely a statement. Hugh. Hugh. Chat, did you guys hear? Sect leader Lu is very skillful at scolding others too. Hugh. Hugh. I'm so tired. The two of them are flying too fast. What the hell, I only noticed this now. This boss can level an entire city. You're right, this venerable one is a bastard. But so what? At least I'm living for myself. And you? You're just a dog for the inferior people. Even if you gave them everything, after you die. No one would remember you decades later. If it weren't for the preparation time needed to destroy these raging flames. I wouldn't have bothered to listen to your nonsense. This venerable one just thought of something interesting Lu Chao GE. Do you want to make a deal with me? Speak. In order to delay time, I have no choice but to use such a strategy regardless of his conditions. If you cut off your head in front of everyone, this venerable one will withdraw the massive flames. What do you think? Cut off my head in front of everyone. Decide quickly. This venerable one will only give you ten seconds. Ten. Chat, do you think Lu Chao GE will agree to this? Lu Chao GE can't die. Only a fool will agree. Impossible. Lu Chao Ge. Lu Chao Ge can't. Chao Ge can't die. Never. Never in a million years. Lu Chao Ge. Lu Chao Ge can't die. My husband can't die. Stop. Darling, don't be deceived by him. Ge can't die. Wake up. Lu Chao Ge. 9. Lord Cultivator, the city is surrounded by a firewall. We can't escape. Only you can save us right now. Only you. Lord Cultivator. 8. If I cut my head off, will you really let them go? 7. Yes. 6. All right. 5. In no way. 4. No. No. Chao Ji no. Three. Two. One. All right, this venerable one agrees. 
No. Lord Cultivator. Shit. Don't. Stop. Mm -hmm. How laughable. In that case, why would I agree? This venerable one was just playing with you just now. You. Then watch them become ashes in front of your eyes. Help. Save me. Kneel down quickly. Kneel and beg the Lord Cultivator. It's useless. It's all useless. We're doomed. It's over. It's all over. Become ashes? Listen. It's water. So much water. The water between heaven and earth has answered this venerable one's call. This. This is Lu Chao Ge. This is Fuck King Lu Chao Ge. You. You actually have the water attribute, which has never been awakened by anyone in 10,000 years. That's right, this venerable one doesn't know why it chose me either, just like right now. This venerable one doesn't know why they are cheering. Is this the sensitivity brought about by some mortal ascension one? It didn't gain sentience. But right now, it's transmitting strange feelings to me. They are cheering, palpitating, and howling with all their strength. They are saying, We've waited a long time for you. My prayer beads were also washed away by the water containing the spiritual energy of heaven and earth. It's fine, there's no need for them anymore. What's strange, water. It's like falling into the endless sea. The fire god is disappearing. It's being devoured. This is the first time. I've felt the sensation of being devoured by someone else. So this is how it feels. The power of heaven and earth. This water. The flames. Disappeared. It's water. The water extinguished the fire. What a timely rain. We survived. It's the Lord Cultivator who saved us. We didn't die. Hooray. Hooray. Yes. Long live Lu Chao Ge. The water attribute turned out to be so powerful. Amazing. Lu Chao Ge is too cool. I told you that Lu Chao Ge will win. This is great. Thank God. He's fine. You won. But if I was at my peak, you would have been dead. Is that so? Perhaps. I spared you because I wanted to ask you a question. If you want to ask if this venerable one regrets his actions, then save your breath. Those inferior people, if this venerable one had another chance, I would still kill them all. No, what I want to ask is, what is Aunt Ning in your eyes? So she has reached the age where she is an aunt or an ancestor. Time passes by too quickly. That's right. What exactly is she to me? Daddy, hug. Daddy, I will practice five more times. I will definitely not shame you. I know that I'm not worthy of the Ning name. I know that you hate me because I killed mother. I know that you wanted a son. But, but it's not like I asked you to have me. Ning Ying. Inger. Actually, when we argued that time, I, I wanted to hug her. At that time, I hadn't hugged her for ten or more years. Master, Marshal Ancestor Ning wanted me to. I knew the two of you would come, that's why I asked that question. Aunt Ning. Thank you. Chao Ge, Aunt Ning is all right. Beep beep. There's a new announcement. New announcement? An important character has been killed, Ning Jianchan. Qingzhou main plot mission, Sword of Hades, progress has increased to 46.8%, original progress 31.8%. The rewards will include both the 30% and 40% phases. The calculation of the rewards for the entire Qingzhou will start soon, the duration will be 48 hours. Ning Jianchan alone turns out to be 15% in the Sword of Hades main plot mission. Ridiculous. 
Unimaginable. That old thing really is a super big boss. I advanced the main plot mission by 25% all by myself. Aren't I going to be numb with rewards? An important character has been killed, Ning Jianchan. Qing Zhou main plot mission, Sword of Hades, progress has increased to 46.8%, original progress 31.8%. The rewards will include both the 30% and 40% phases. The calculation of the rewards for the entire Qing Zhou will start soon, the duration will be 48 hours. Hooray! Lu Chao GE is awesome. Woohoo! Won't the other three continents be envious to death? I'm going to post this. I want to brag to the players from the other three continents. Ha ha ha. Cool. Is this the benefit from being carried? Although I joined the Yin Yang Sword Pool, at this moment, I am an MO Sec disciple in spirit. Dead, he's really dead. It's the power of Heavenly Tao, but it's a tiny bit of it. When it was given to him, it was at 1%. This tiny bit is barely 0.01% that Heaven's Secret Helper is really a loser. Whatever, whatever. The flames in Tianxian world need to be fiercer. Dragging your feet like this, when will you be able to return to that world? Woof woof woof. Okay okay, I'm in a good mood today so I will only smoke one stick, I promise. Woof. Smiling apologetically. Master, do you want me to escort Marshal Ancestor Ning secretly? Aunt Ning is an official of Sword Sect, a major sect of Qing Zhou, don't underestimate her. We have someone else we need to meet. There's someone else? Amitba, my friend Lu, you do live up to your reputation. That is Blooming Lotus Steps, a type of floating method using spiritual energy. It is much more powerful than our suspended flight and can only be used if you are at 7th rank or above. What an immense amount of spiritual energy. Who exactly are they? Mo6 Lu Chao Ge greets the Arhat and the Judge of Death. Arhat. Judge of Death. So they are Lord Arhat and Lady Judge of Death who are as famous as Senior Sword Sovereign. Two of the four saints of Tianqian actually appeared here at the same time. The two seniors have been watching the show for so long, I wonder why are the both of you looking for me? These two seniors intentionally did not hide their aura. If I didn't finish Ning Jinshan off just now, they would probably take action. Amitba, I've heard the Sword Sovereign and the Saint talk about you so I wanted to see if you're as talented as they say. Me too. Oh? Then what do the two of you think about me? Not bad. You're better than what you're described in the rumors. Master received the acknowledgement of Lady Judge of Death and Lord Arhat. My master is really powerful. That's all? If I follow the flow of this conversation, there might be a chance of triggering effective guidance from these two experts. That way, I'll be numb with rewards. There is something else. It's here, it's here. The moment when effective guidance is triggered is here. As expected of me with a value 10 charisma. This monk has heard that a disciple from your MO sect has a connection with Senior Luo Hashan. Senior Luo's sword is still hanging at the endless sea. Senior Luo's sword. Thank you, Senior, for your information, may I ask. Who did Senior Luo use his 10th slash against? It's a 9th rank dragon beast. Dragon Blast Frigid Dragon Foot Senior Luo unleashed his slash to protect the people of Tianqian. Ninth rank. Dragon Beast, among the demonic beasts, their race is considered to be noble. And it's ninth rank as well. If it had appeared in Qingzhou, a tragic disaster would have happened. To think that Luo Hashan can kill a ninth rank demonic beast, his tenth slash is indeed unparalleled. But the risk of this technique is too great. Once the tenth slash is unleashed, you will undoubtedly die. If this kid Yang Shu were to die, even I would be very devastated. 
Is there a way to limit the power to be the same as the ninth slash and make every slash a ninth slash? Perhaps these three directions can give me some clues. You've absorbed 0.1% of Heavenly Dad. For every 10% you absorb, you will receive a hidden reward. Note, once you absorb 100% of Heavenly Dad, you will unlock a valuable reward. Ching Zhou main plot mission, Sword of Hades, progress has increased to 46.8%, original progress 31.8%. The rewards will include both the 30% and 40% phases. The calculation of the rewards for the entire Ching Zhou will start soon. The duration will be 48 hours. The three of you give me something. Amitba, Sect Leader Lu, we have a presumptuous request. Please say. With their level of power, what could they need my help for? This old monk and the judge of death would like to invite you to spar with our direct disciples. If you can defeat them, I will give you something valuable. If I lose, then you shall give the orb of chaos to us. Orb of chaos, that is an orb formed accidentally when absorbing the heavenly Tao from heaven's secret helper. The heavenly Tao can't be used by me, so I turned it into this item. I originally thought that they didn't know about its existence, but it looks like. I can't hide anything from their eyes. Does Lord Arhut know what it's used for? No, but this item contains immense power. Perhaps it will be useful. All right, if your direct disciples can defeat me, this item will be given to the both of you to safe keep. That's a good thing after all. Sect Leader Lu is indeed easy to talk with in that case. Let's have the duel three days later. Farewell. Amitba, my disciple Nan Wu cultivates the silent Zen. If he uses his full strength, he might not lose to him. It's the same for my Bailu. I got two valuable items for free, hey hey hey. This venerable one dares to come to the duel, but will the two of them be the same? Tianxian world. Bailu should have already returned to the House of Houses. Since I've made a bet with sect leader Lu, I have to find Bailu quickly and train her as much as possible in these three days. Mountain of Mountains This is one of the four sacred grounds in Tianqian World Mountain of Mountains. Although this Mountain of Mountains is on equal footing with the Sword Sect, Buddhist Sect, and Spring Autumn Mountain, it is not a complete sect like the others. Mountain of Mountains is an alliance of cultivators from 72 peaks and led by a leader. It is more like a gang than a sect. Judge of Death's Residence House of Houses Just like the Black Bamboo Forest in Sword Sect, House of Houses is a sacred ground in the Mountain of Mountains. Master, you're back. I returned to the mountain yesterday, but why did you only come back today? Where did you go to play without bringing your disciple along? H.M. I made a bet with M.O. Sex Sect Leader about who would win and who would lose. There's no time to explain. Speed up your cultivation quickly. I will teach you some secret techniques. Ah? A bet with M.O. Sex Sect Leader? Master, do you mean? Sparring with him? What's wrong? To tell you the truth, Master, I've already fought with Sect Leader Lu alongside that big baldy from Buddhist Sect and... We lost. Together with Buddhist sex Nanwu? Yes, and we lost together. This girl, she's getting crazier and crazier. I really don't know how to manage her. She shouldn't be so obsessed with me. She should find a man to marry and have children. In that case, you're dismissed. Ah, master, I just saw you I haven't even. You fought together with Arhut's disciple and you still lost. Why are you not seeking to improve yourself? But, but. And you don't know how to repent too. Go. Wa master. You're so bad. I really like it. Bailu might be ill. I should find her a good doctor. Mo6 Lu Chao Ge. To think that he could win against both Bailu and Nanwu together. He's quite a good match with my Bailu. But how detestable, he had already won and yet he still tried to cheat me of my treasure. Xianzhou Buddhist Sect 
Wall facing peak. You and Mubailu lost to that kid from MO sect? At this moment, the Arhat from Xian Zhou's Buddhist sect was equally shocked. That brat. He clearly doesn't want to give up the Orb of Chaos and wanted to trick me of my treasure. That is really detestable. Why is Master this angry? Trembling in anger. Qing Zhou Danqing Peak. M.O. Sect. And the biggest winner is an M.O. Sect accepting new. Newcomers. So this is what sect leader brought back. These treasures? I am Yubai. It's a pleasure to meet everyone. I am Lan Ji. It's a pleasure to meet everyone. I. I am Hu Pe. It's a pleasure to meet everyone. Sect leader, are you not going to explain this? Since Elder Donley wants an explanation, the three of you will tell your story to my MO6 Elder Donley. Yes. Sect leader. A while later dash. The three of them told the rest of the MO sect disciples present how their lives were abused and controlled by Heaven's secret helper. How despicable. Absolutely despicable. The lives of these sisters are too pitiful. From now on all of you will be our MO sect disciples, no one will ever dare to hurt you. To really become M.O. sect disciples, we have to get verbal confirmation by the sect leader, but the disciples of M.O. sect are really few in number. Our background is an embarrassment. I'm afraid we might not even be qualified to be disciples. Even being a menial disciple is good enough. Sect leader Lu. Will he really want us with our lowly statuses? MHM, this sect leader announces that from this day forth, Yu Bai, Lan Ji, and Hu Po will officially become my MO sex outer disciples. In a while, this venerable one will personally offer your names to the ancestors, you all must follow the teachings of my MO sect and uphold justice. Oh, right, I should put them under Elder Dong Li's name. To think that he will let us become outer disciples. That would mean that we will become official disciples. He really took us in. He. He did not turn his back on us. Thank you, sect leader, for granting our wish. Spiritual wind technique activate. After accepting these three fifth rank great cultivators, I have to increase the standards of my MO sect. But that's not urgent. I still have other rewards to claim first. It's the dead of the night. It's time to sort out the rewards I got from this fake solo clear of the Heavenly Secrets Tower dungeon. You've cleared the Heaven Secret Tower Dungeon. Do you wish to receive clear rewards? Yes. Currently greeting the current clear. You've killed three of the four middle tower masters. You've killed one Heaven Secret Tower head. You've killed one Sword of Hades. You've subdued three of the three upper tower masters. S the evaluation is. S dash. System, did you evaluate wrongly? Do you wish to redeem your reward? Countdown, 10 seconds. You bastard. I will redeem. It looks like not killing all the bosses decreased the system's evaluation of me. Forget it, that three hot ladies from the Heavenly Secrets Tower are more worth it. S dash, so be it. Redemption successful. Your dungeon clear rewards will be distributed. You've killed Sword of Hades Ning Jianshan and received EXP 30 million. Clear reward EXP 1 million. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. This venerable one didn't see wrongly, did I? Killing Ning Jianshan already gave me 30 million EXP, but the clear reward 15 just 1 million EXP? Are you ripping me off? There's more rewards being unlocked. There's other rewards? Clear reward. 1. Receive the rights to view all information in Heaven's Secrets Tower. I've subdued the three upper tower masters. Haven't I already unlocked this? Stop playing with me or I will slice you. Clear reward. 2. Emperor Qing's inheritance. Clue. 2. Can be read after level 60. Another clue regarding Emperor Qing's inheritance. How many clues are there? I guess this clue is somewhat useful. There's more? Clear reward, 3. 
Receive information about a hidden boss. You may choose between Qingzhou, Beizhou, Luzhou, Xianzhou. Please make your choice. Qingzhou, Beizhou, Luzhou, Xianzhou. Oh, this is quite interesting. A hidden boss. If I'm going to choose, then naturally I will choose Qingzhou. You've received a piece of information. One of the higher-ups in Sword Sect is a great demonic cultivator in Purple Moon Cult. This person has a small birthmark on his chest. Purple Moon Cult, great demonic cultivator. To think that it will be higher up in the Sword Sect. And with a birthmark as well. But even with this information, it won't be easy to find. Hi, please show me your chests. Why do I feel like going around and asking this question will be quite dangerous for me? Speaking of which, Aunt Ning is also a higher up in sword sect. No, Aunt Ning is my mother's friend. She's off limits. No, no, that's too deranged. I can't think about it. Another notification, but it seems different. There's still 24 hours left before the calculation for the 30% and 40% phases are complete. The two bosses in the Heaven Secrets Tower Dungeon are actually related to Qingzhou main plot mission, Sword of Hades 1. So it does not matter if the rewards for killing them are terrible, the true rewards are right here. But before that, there is something I need to do. What happened to Senior Luo? That kid should have already known. S Sect Leader, Senior Brother Why are you guys here? Where are you going after packing your belongings? I got seen through. Replying to sect leader, Grandpa has already passed on and I wanted to go back to the fishing village by the ocean to sort out Grandpa's stuff and see the place where Grandpa used his final slash. I also want to set up a tomb for him. Grandpa doesn't have any children, I wish. To take it upon myself to handle Grandpa's funeral arrangement. I can't let Grandpa leave just like this. He does not even have someone to burn the joss paper for him. Woo woo. Don't cry. This is what you should do. But this time, your senior brother will be accompanying you. Thank you, sect leader, for granting my wish. Master, can I? Do it? I've never gone on a journey. And I. You'll have to experience it sooner or later. You've stepped into the fifth realm after all. Hey Ting, you must understand that everyone has their own path, and if you don't take the step forward, you will never know what it looks like. Master. Yes, this disciple understands. Hey Ting is leaving, but why is my heart aching? That kid has never left me all these years. And I do not know if he will be fine. But, growing up has always been a solitary endeavor. Young Master, Luo Bing has something to report. Speak. It's finally here. If it still did not come, I would have forgotten about those guys. Previously, Young Master ordered me to announce a mission to the menial disciples, and as of right now, 34 of them have reached the third rank. The top three are Lin Ari, Lin Huagan, and Mo Bushio. Good. Good. Very good. Luo Bing. Those guys are pretty good. They're faster than I imagined. Yes. Set up a ceremonious stage. This time, this venerable one will personally hand their rewards to them. Yes. Lord Sect Leader. Since I have decided to ignite the enthusiasm of those disasters, I must do a thorough job. Eye of Chaos, when you wake up, you will experience the horror of the players cultivated by this venerable one. I will create a fearless monster army. He he he. Wow. Look at the system notification. It's a major event. Sec mission personal assessment by the MO sect sec master. Assessment period of one month has now ended. Rewards will be distributed soon. Oh my goodness. Has it already been a month? I haven't even reached level 30 yet. LV-30, Drunken Sword is not cheap. LV-25, Big Hero doesn't worry about rain. 
LV27, as long FS, I'm Trish, it's Sullers. Ha ha ha. I've reached level 30. I can learn purple grade skill books now. LV34, Lenarian. A bunch of ignorant fools. This time, I can not only learn purple grade skill books. I can even obtain a limited edition artifact. Mix now ye at. What's so great about you? I'm just as good. Humph. My artifact is definitely better than yours. Mine is better than yours. Nonsense. Mine will definitely be better than yours. Mine is better. Mine is better. LV35 Lin Ali. With this reward distribution, maybe we'll meet the sect master. Finally, the day has come to meet the sect master. I must leave a good impression on him. Mine is better. Nonsense. Mine is better. Oh no. My makeup. I, I am sorry. It's all his fault. It's your fault, okay? You pushed me. Miss, are you? Are you okay? The water is really cold. Come up quickly, don't catch a cold. I'm going to kill both of you. Help. Save me. Help. Murder. Your makeup won't help. The sick master won't show up here. That's Senior Luo Bing. No matter how many times I see this person, this person is so beautiful. Luo Bing Senior Sister is truly like a fairy. The sick mission has already ended, everyone. The sick master will personally present the rewards to you. I didn't hear it wrong, did I? The sect master will personally present the rewards? Ah, uh, am I some kind of prophet? I, I, spare my wretched life, please. Help. Ah, uh, don't run. Let me chop you to death. That was close. Luckily, I didn't say anything foolish. Indeed, as a menial disciple, I still lack composure. The three of you are the outstanding menial disciples of our MO sect. Well done, well done. Lin Ali, Lin Hua Qian, and MOBU. This is a purple grade cultivation technique from the rewards. Study it diligently day and night. The chi drinking technique. It's really a purple grade cultivation technique. Wow dash. Sec master, you're truly amazing. I thought having a yellow grade technique in our low grade sec was already impressive. With a purple grade cultivation technique, the rate of experience gain will increase even more. It's time to strive for level 50 as soon as possible. This is what he gave me, still carrying his scent. Let's finish quickly and hand over the artifact to them. Looking at it again, I can't help but burst into laughter. In addition, these are special rewards for the first three to reach the third realm. This is a flying artifact I personally crafted, take it. It's an item that hasn't appeared in the marketplace until now. It's the rarest flying artifact. This is the treasure he personally gave me. Limited edition attack, yellow grade low tier artifact, paper crane, a flying artifact that can be activated by infusing spiritual energy. Note, the sword aura of the MO sect sect master 15 engraved on the artifact and can be triggered. Thank you, sect master. It even has the sect master's sword aura engraved on it. What a lucrative gain. Limited Edition Defense Yellow Grade Low Tier Artifact Paper Crane A flying artifact that can be activated by infusing spiritual energy. Note, the artifact is engraved with a water-based defensive formation that can withstand attacks from below the fourth realm once activated. Mine also has a defensive formation engraved on it. Thank you, Sec Master. He really 
has a special feeling towards me. Yellow grade low tier artifact paper crane, a flying artifact that can be activated by infusing spiritual energy. Darn it, the artifact reward I obtained as the third rank doesn't have any additional effects. I'm so frustrated. If only I had worked harder. I'm so envious. It's actually a flying artifact personally crafted by the sect master. The top two have engraved something else in their artifacts. If I were to ride this thing and go for a joyride, I can't even imagine how cool it would be. Next time, I'll work even harder to level up. Next time, I want to receive the sect master's reward too. Me too. I can't let these guys take all the benefits. Next time, the flying artifact will be mine. I'll give it my all. I'm going to level up. Ah. Players are truly the best tools in this world. Not only do they not find leveling up painful, but they willingly stay up all night and grind. TSK, TSK, TSK. They're all hardworking individuals. Since that's the case, let's add fuel to the fire for you all. Disciples, the first person to complete the sect mission next time will be granted. The Lifebound Sword. Work hard, everyone. Ah. Did you hear that? It's the Lifebound Sword, ah. That's the legendary sword that can level up. Let's go all out. From today onwards, I won't sleep. I'll compete with you. Come on. Let's all grind together. Who's afraid of who? As is widely known, all sword cultivators possess a lifebound sword. The lifebound sword, also known as the lifebound artifact, is a sword closely tied to the cultivator's life. By infusing spiritual energy, experience points, the cultivator can enhance the level of the lifebound sword, strengthening it alongside themselves. Furthermore, as the lifebound sword levels up, there is a possibility of triggering various incredible special effects, such as minds and harmony, hearts connected, love and kill, familial love and respect, and many more. Minds and harmony. Hearts connected. Love and kill. Familial love and respect. Look, it's a lifebound flying sword. So cool. It said that they are intimately connected, just like one's own spouse. Legend has it that the lifebound flying sword can also level up, making it an upgradable artifact. Who wouldn't be fascinated by that? I also want such an artifact. Do you think I don't want it? I also want it, okay. It's easy to imagine the allure of a lifebound sword, a weapon that can level up alongside oneself and has a chance to trigger special effects. It's incredibly tempting for a sword cultivator and a player like me. And the reward promised by Lu Chowga to all the miscellaneous disciples of the M.O. sect is precisely such a lifebound sword. Lu Chowga's residence. The enthusiasm of the players has been unprecedentedly stirred up. The players are filled with fiery passion. But the problem is... Lu Chowga actually doesn't know how to forge a lifebound sword. He can't even forge the lowest grade yellow level sword because he doesn't have the forging blueprint. And to unlock the forging blueprint for a yellow level sword from the system, the cost is exorbitant. This is the requirement for exchanging the yellow grade sword forging blueprint. To unlock the yellow grade sword embryo forging blueprint, you need to consume 1 million experience points, blue grade monster heart x21. Unlock the yellow grade sword forging blueprint. Requires consumption of 1 million experience points. Clue grade monster heart x2. 1 million experience points are not a big deal, but the monster hearts. What are they? Blue grade monster heart, the heart of a level 4150 monster. The heart of a level 4150 monster. Why does it feel like there's a secret hidden within the lifebound sword? Why is the sword related to monster hearts? Then, if I want to forge a higher level one, wouldn't I need? That's right, the higher level forging blueprints require more monster hearts. Unlocking the blue grade sword forging blueprint requires consumption. 5 million experience points. Blue grade monster heart x5, purple grade monster heart x1. 
Yellow Grade Sword Forging Proficiency 100% Unlocking the Purple Grade Sword Forging Blueprint Requires Consumption 250 million experience points, Purple Grade Monster Heart X3, Orange Grade Monster Heart X1. Blue Grade Sword Forging Proficiency 100%. Unlocking the Orange Grade Sword Forging Blueprint requires consumption. 250 million experience points, Purple Grade Monster Heart X5, Orange Grade Monster Heart X2, Ancient Eight Realms Exotic Beast Heart X1. Purple Grade Sword Forging Proficiency 100%. Purple Grade Monster Heart Orange Grade Monster Heart Ancient Exotic Beast Heart It's unexpectedly difficult to obtain the materials for forging the lifebound sword from the system for free. My sword was a gift from Ant Ning, and all the sword in the M.O. Sick were gifts from Ant Ning. I wonder what level that is. I can detect it. Detecting Detection in progress Detection complete that is not a valid level. Current level, LV29. Experience points required for leveling up, 29843 slash, O injected. Sword technique damage amplification, 29%, next level, increased by 30%. Special effect triggered, none. Awakened sword spirit, none. Owner, Lu Chauga. Sai, it stuck at level 29. Ever since I used it to slay the demon, I've been forgetting to accumulate experience for it. And why is the word injected used? So, my sword is actually a blue-grade high-quality sword. That makes sense. It's unlikely that even Aunt Ning could forge a purple-grade sword. Although she's dedicated to forging, she is ultimately a sword cultivator. Moreover, normal sword cultivators wouldn't accumulate experience like I do. It seems that even in top 6, purple grade swords are extremely rare. If in the future, every disciple of the M.O. sect possesses an orange grade sword, wouldn't that be extraordinary? I've made up my mind. I must exchange for the forging blueprint. But before that, let's first raise it to a higher level. Injecting experience points. Yes, let's begin leveling up the lifebound sword. It has reached its maximum level. Eternal life. Why do I feel a sense of joy and celebration? Who are you celebrating for? It's strange. It seems so excited. Have you also felt it? A blue grade high quality sword. Current level, LV53. Experience points required for leveling up, 29843 slash co injected. Sword technique damage amplification, 53%. Next level, increased by 54%. Special effect triggered, water affinity. When the sword is infused with water, damage is increased by 15% and sword weight is reduced by 15%. Awakened sword spirit, none. Owner, Lu Chauga. Although the sword spirit has not yet awakened, a special effect has been triggered. Well done, young man. This comes in handy for me. Now, the dampened sword has become even more offensive. However, the most pressing matter is to exchange for the yellow grade sword forging blueprint. Mass producing yellow grade sword will arm the sandbagging players and give us a better chance of dealing with the heavenly secrets cataclysm. In the short term, it may take a year, and in the long term, it may take three years, but we must make the most of every moment to enhance the combat capabilities of all members of the M.O. sect. If I can elevate the M.O. sect to become a top-grade sect, then the catastrophe will be the calamity of the world on the side of the Chaos Eye. System, open the mainline mission panel for the sect. Since we're aiming to become a top-grade sect, it's time to push forward with the progress of this mainline mission. Qingzhou Mainline Mission Reward 15 about to be issued. Wait, they're giving out this reward now. Then let's claim this reward first. You have received Koingzhou Mainline Mission 30% and 40% stage rewards. Verifying the contribution points you provided. Reward content being generated. 
Come on, let's see what I will receive this time. Reward has been generated. Based on your contribution to this Qingzhou mainline mission, Sword of the Underworld, you have received 12 random attribute points. 10. 12 random attribute points. No way. Is this for real? If I allocate all of them to my sword cultivation aptitude, wouldn't I directly break through? Spear cultivation aptitude 11. Staff cultivation aptitude 11. Blade cultivation aptitude 11. Divine consciousness 11. Divine consciousness 11. Spear cultivation aptitude 11. Blade cultivation aptitude 11. Okay, 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 so it's random, huh? Aside from enhancing the heart sword with divine consciousness, what are the other things they gave me? Damn system. I'm going all out against you. And what about those five remaining random attribute points? Should I open them or destroy them? Destruction is about to commence. I was just kidding with you. Open them. Generating random attribute points. Can you stop making it so flashy and extravagant every time? Physique 11. Precision 11. Physique 11. Heaven and Earth Affinity 11. Sword Cultivation Aptitude 11. This time it's looking good. Just the Heaven and Earth Affinity and Sword Cultivation Aptitude alone have made it worth it. Heaven and Earth Affinity will greatly enhance my control over the Enlightenment power. It was really helpful in the previous battle. After allocating the points this time, my Heaven and Earth Affinity will be increased to 5 points. Absorb all the allocated points. Lu Chaoga has gained Spear Cultivation Aptitude 2, Staff Cultivation Aptitude 1, Clade Cultivation Aptitude 2, Divine Consciousness 2, Physique 2, Chivin and Earth Affinity 1, Precision 1, Sword Cultivation Aptitude 1. Now I have 6 points in Sword Cultivation Aptitude, and both Sword Intent and Sword Heart can be further upgraded. Moreover, I still have 2 in used half price coupons that I've saved. System, Upgrade Sword Heart and Sword Intent. Consumed, Sword Heart Experience Half Price Coupon. Consumed, Sword Intent Experience Half Price Coupon. Sword Heart LV5 to LV6. Sword Intent LV5 to LV6. This. This is. The Sec Master has broken through again? No way. Lu Chaoga has shown prowess once more? Is our Sec Master specialized in producing special effects? This is fantastic. A strong Sec Master means a strong MO sect. I can rest easy from now on. Brother, how much have you comprehended tonight? Even my longevity is trembling like a sieve. Phew. The sixth level, so this is how it feels. I have entered the realm of the Sword Heart's Bright Mirror. You have awakened the Sword Heart Mirror, and your innate divine ability, Heart Sword, has been strengthened and advanced to New Soul Heart Sword. Explanation of the New Soul Heart Sword Effect Building upon the foundation of the Heart Sword capable of injuring divine souls, it has now advanced to the ability to slay divine souls. Current Effect capable of slaying the divine souls of beings up to the fourth realm and below. With every three levels of Sword Dao aptitude improvement, new effects can be obtained. Awakening the Heart Sword at the third level, and at the sixth level, granting the Heart Sword the power to kill. In the future, weaklings below the fourth realm can be instantly killed with a single glance. It's quite a nice improvement. I'm quite satisfied. I wonder what kind of effect awaits when the Sword Dao aptitude reaches the ninth level. However, those distant matters are not important now. Let's first complete my clan main quest, strengthening the MO sect. System, open the quest log. NQQBGB. Strengthening the MO sect. Promotion to sixth rank. Quest details. One have a total of 100 members in the sect who are at level 20 or above. Completed 394-1001, 1001, 
to attain a sect reputation value of 15,000 completed, current reputation value 547,808. 3. Have two cultivators at the 5th realm or above, or 5 cultivators at the 4th realm current progress, 6 halves, completed. Rewards upon completion, 1 experience points, 5 million 2 sword dad aptitude x13 random special item. Claim rewards. Clan quest strengthening the MO sect, current stage completed. Would you like to claim the rewards? The silly players didn't disappoint me. Over 300 people have reached level 20 or above, and there are already more than 30 at the top level. Not bad. The MO sect has been promoted to 6th rank sect. Experience gained speed for disciples increased by 10%. MO sect reputation provides protection, reducing the chance of being oppressed by 10%. Probability of encountering wild monsters increased by 10% for disciples. Great. I was just wondering how to level up quickly, and our sect has advanced again. We were only an 8th rank sect when I joined, and now we're 6th rank in the blink of an eye. Our sect leader is so capable, I'm just going to enjoy the benefits. At this rate, one day the MO sect will become a top tier sect. Received 5 million experience points. Received one sword or aptitude. Received one random special item. Another increase in sword Dao aptitude, but I won't add it for now. Without the 50% off coupons, the required experience for leveling up sword heart and sword intent is too exaggerated. The heartless system is so ruthless. It's so stingy with experience points, requiring a ridiculous amount to level up skills. Sword Heart LV7 requires 64 million experience points to level up. Sword Intent LV7 requires 64 million experience points to level up. Since even the silly players have reached the third realm stage, it's time to improve my true disciples in the MO sect. System, check the current status of the MO sect's outer disciples. LV51 LV34 LV32 LV31, LV24. Except for hiding, it seems that the other disciples haven't even reached the fourth realm. TSK. I need to focus on educating the MO sect disciples. Starting from tomorrow, everyone will receive intensified training from me. Oh, by the way, my harmony of heaven and earth seems to have reached five points. I wonder what level I can achieve now. Let it rain. Let's give it a try. The water controlling power of Chauga has become even stronger. Sword Heart Mirror. Not bad. With his progress at this speed, given enough time, he will surely reach realms I have never reached. If that's the case, I can safely go into seclusion. I must not disappoint Senior Luo's guidance. Only by breaking through the ninth realm will I truly have the possibility of protecting heavenly secrets. Hmm. The water now. Can cover about one third of Qingzhou. If I further enhance harmony of heaven and earth. I'm the god of water. Wouldn't I become the god of heavenly secrets? A new clan quest has been accepted. Would you like to view it? Oh, the sect just leveled up. We can now take on new quests. Strengthening the MO sect. Promotion to 5th rank. Quest details. 1. Have a total of 100 members in the sect who are at level 30 or above. Not completed. 2. Attain a sect reputation value of 30,000. Completed. Current reputation value 547,808. 3. Have two cultivators at the 6th realm or above, or 5 cultivators at the 5th realm. Current progress, 1 half, not completito. Rewards upon completion. 1 experience points, 10 million 2 random attribute points x53 random special item. Wait, before we talk about whether the system just gave me a random special item, what's this one about? 3. Have two cultivators at the 6th realm or above, or 5 cultivators at the 5th realm. Current progress, January 2nd, not completed. 
What realm is Zyalize in anyway? How much has this little girl been hiding it from me, her big brother? Forget it, let it be. It doesn't matter anymore. I've gotten used to the fact that my little sister is tough but resilient. In the adult world, it's full of let it go. Oh, by the way, system. Bring out the random special item as a reward for promoting to a sixth rank sect. Ancient Five Elements Formation True Resolution Purple Grade Top Quality It's actually a purple grade top quality formation book. It's just one step away from being orange grade. Should I learn it? After a moment. Someone gave up trying because they couldn't understand. I'll give it to Zyalize. She loves learning formations, and I don't want to bother with these things. Big Brother has become much stronger. The stronger Big Brother becomes, the more stable Danching Mountain will be. I'm really happy for Big Brother. He he. The Chaos I in Qingzhou is the main focus. The other three places are nothing but under the control of the Chaos I in Qingzhou. But, the calamity that even our master and the Lord couldn't overcome, what are the chances for me and Big Brother to survive? That's why I need to work even harder. As long as I become stronger than our master, I will definitely be able to protect Big Brother. It's Big Brother. Why is he knocking on my door so late? Big Brother, why are you here so late? Zyalize, I just picked up a treasure on the roadside, and I thought you would like it, so I brought it to you. On the roadside? Ancient Five Elements Formation True Resolution Big Brother, did you really pick this up on the roadside? If this is true, then it's the Supreme Formation Masterpiece of the Ancient Sect Five Elements Gate. From a formation perspective alone, it surpasses even the Heavenly Tao. Is it really that incredible? If it's true, I'll try it out to find out. It, it really works. Big Brother, this, this is an authentic piece. Are you sure? You found it on the roadside? Brother, please tell me quickly, where did this thing come from? I've told you already, it's something I found. System matters are something that can't be explained to her. At this moment, you must remain firm and not give in, maintain a thick skin. I don't believe it. Why didn't others find such a precious thing? Why did you happen to find it, brother? Since you don't believe me, then I'll take it back and throw it where I found it, since it's a gift to someone, and that someone doesn't seem to want it. No. Since you gave it to me, it's mine. Good night, brother. Thank you for the gift, brother. Fighting me is still not possible. This must be the treasure that brother obtained this time in destroying the Heavenly Secrets Pavilion. He went through trials and tribulations, yet I get the good stuff. I will make good use of this scroll, completely fortify the protective mountain formation of my M.O. sect, so that my brother will have no worries. And then we will grow old together until the end of time. Donley will become a saint in the future. Since we want to enhance the disciples' strength, the best way is to take them out for experience. I also need to activate the yellow grade sword forging diagrammy. Obviously, going to Lujo where the demon clan gathers is the best choice. If we're going to Lujo, Luo Bing is the best choice. She seems to have some connection with exotic beasts and the demon clan. Then let's decide on her. Oh, as an outstanding sect leader, I am truly concerned about the sect. Senior sect leader, are you really going to take me down the mountain for training? Ah, uh, yes. The other disciples are diligently practicing on the mountain. Don't waste your time. You Bai and the others went back to the Heavenly Secrets Pavilion to look for sword techniques suitable for everyone. They will return in a few days. I won't allow it. Luo Bing already has inappropriate feelings for my brother. Wouldn't going down the mountain be like entering a tiger's den? Then give that thing back to me. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, this. This. I. I agree. Wow. Brother actually used that formation to threaten me. How despicable. Since no one is against it, 
Then it's settled. We depart tomorrow. Yes. Damn, why do I feel like I'm being toyed with by my brother? Young master, if we are going to Luzhou, where should we go first? I heard that half of Luzhou is the territory of the demon clan. I have never seen what demons look like. This time we are going to find the demon clan. We are specifically going to find the demon clan. To exchange the ILO grade sword forging diagrammy from the exchange system, we need two hearts of demons from the four realms. We have to go pluck them from the demon clan. To enhance the overall strength of the sand sculpture players, the main sword is a must-have. I haven't seen demons either, but in my past life, I have seen many in other comics. They probably all look like this. But there are also these. These ones, they probably like eating people, so taking their hearts would be doing a service to the world. It's a pity Lujo is too far. It will take five days to reach the border of Lujo. Let's spend these five days practicing the breath absorption technique together with Luo Bing. Although our MO6 breath absorption technique can absorb the spiritual energy of heaven and earth for one's own spiritual power, practicing it is truly too painful. Truly worthy of being a young master, for such a painfully intense cultivation method, there is not a hint of. Luo Bing, take a rest for a moment. So even the senior sect leader bleeds from the seven apertures. But even with blood flowing from the seven apertures, he is still the most handsome young master. It's the demon clan. We found them. This is the border of Luzhou. What a handsome man, even more good-looking than the most handsome male in the clan. Oh no, just now I was so mesmerized by that man's face. This is bad. She is the princess of the Qingyu clan. We need to capture her alive. Yes. Yes. Quick, catch up. She's heavily injured. She can't escape far. Young master. Those people just now, were they demons? Should we go do something? It seems so, and if we do, of course, we must, after all. Among those three black figures, the leader seems to have broken through the four realms. He he he. I need to leave this place quickly, or they will catch up with me. The Qingyu clan will be finished like that. Princess of the Qingyu clan, where do you think you're going? Oh no. Ah. Our general is quite fond of you, so you can't leave this time. This time, elder brother captured the princess, the general will definitely reward generously. If elder brother gains benefits, don't forget about us, brothers. No problem. Once I break through the fifth realm and transform, you all will benefit as well. What is that? It seems to be a human artifact. Human cultivator, are you going to meddle in the affairs of our demon clan? We practitioners have always upheld the principle of supporting the weak and opposing the strong. You all don't seem like good people. The clan forcibly abducted a young girl. Please, immortal, come to the rescue. Perhaps this is my only chance to escape. I must seize it. Oh? Forcibly abducting their own kind, isn't that a serious crime among the demon clan as well? We must act decisively. If this reaches the ears of the three saints, our clan will be in trouble. Why not? Just slaughter him. Perfect, I haven't tasted human flesh in a long time. Get him. Tear his face apart. A mere human unexpectedly has such outstanding abilities. Execute. Luo Bing, rescue her. Yes. Senior sect leader. Be torn to shreds under the claws of our clan. W. Watt is this after all? Spare a life now, and it may bring better materials later. The soul-cutting heart sword is truly useful, directly annihilating souls below the fourth realm. 
Compared to the past effects of only injuring and intimidating, it's really so much better. Moreover, the individual killed in this way, with an intact body, can have the demon clan's heart extracted. Alas, it's truly pitiful. Why did you decide to take my heart? How is the situation? T thank you, esteemed cultivator, for saving me. Young master. She is severely injured, has lost a lot of blood, and simply stopping the bleeding is not having much effect. I am not skilled in saving people. Although she is also at the fourth realm, taking advantage of someone's weakness is not the act of a gentleman. Esteemed cultivator, please do not panic. My Chingyu clan is descendants of the holy demon Phoenix. Could you please protect the young girl for a moment? If the two of them do not agree to protect me, I will undoubtedly die today. System Detection Princess Level 41, Current Status, Critically Work Hint, rescuing her may have a chance to obtain a special item. Young Master Very well, we can protect you. A special item She is actually the princess of the Chingyu clan. It seems this trip will not only yield the heart of a demon clan. Thank you, esteemed cultivator. The ways of the demon clan are indeed different from our human ways, but also different from the slaughter-filled aura of the exotic beasts. Demons, exotic beasts, they seem like two completely unrelated races. Young master, she has encountered us by chance, what do you? Could it be that the young master is interested in her body? Oh, because she has a large chest. Ah, let's just come up with a random excuse. That's really it. I. I. Damn it, I. How could I? Here it comes, a stronger aura than that black bird person at the fourth realm just now. Such a fierce cry. General. It's that guy. A mere human cultivator, daring to meddle in our demon clan's affairs. We should use his heart and liver as a toast. Young Lord. They. Don't be nervous, we can't afford to tarnish the prestige of our M.O. sect. Luo Bing, you stay with the female monster, leave the rest to this venerable one. Yes. Young Master. Human, are you the one who killed my man? Black-winged Eagle General, LV-53 Prominent among the Black-winged Eagle Clan, he has entered the fifth rank and is a great monster. If you kill him, there is a chance that you'll receive fifth rank Monster Core. Monster Core seems to be a precious treasure. Human, why aren't you replying to this venerable one? Don't tell me you are mute. Why is there suddenly fog? This venerable one only likes to look down at people. Besides, you are just a fifth rank monster. That's right. Your men wanted to kill me, but they were not strong enough. It was their fate to die by my hands. Looking down at this venerable one. Just a fifth rank monster. You really have the guts. Tear him into pieces. Sigh. Your time has come. Trash, don't waste my time. Soul slaving swung heart. Run. Don't get caught by that golden light. You will die. Help. Save. Not bad. A fifth rank great monster is still much stronger than those small fries. No wonder you're special. Bastard. To think that it would be a technique related to the divine soul. As long as I get close to you, you won't have the chance to use that divine soul technique. A move that can only deal with inferior monsters will not work on this venerable one. I will kill you, Ah. Not bad. There are some traces of blade techniques. For a monster to have such skill, it's already quite impressive. But it's a shame that there is no depth to your attacks, and you didn't think about making the winged slash even stronger. This venerable one doesn't need you to evaluate me. Once I cut off your head. Wait, did you just call those who follow you? 
Inferior monsters? Those who cannot step into the fifth rank and change their form are naturally inferior. No matter how many of them die, it still will not be a loss. It looks like the way the monster race views the world is greatly different from humans. It's quite scummy. What, are you finally going to have a real battle with this venerable one? Are your human weapons worthy of competing with my feathers? Fragile human weapon, be slashed apart by this venerable one's iron feathers. You've worked hard. You killed another evil being once again. It's the body of that great monster. The princess of the Jade Falcon. As long as I get her. This venerable one. Can still live. A third rank human cultivator. This venerable one shall kill you first to vent my anger. Die. So fast. I can't even see it clearly. This is bad. Luo Bing. Be careful. I did it. This. What. Is all this. What happened to me just now? That's right. That monster was about to kill me, and my neck was injured. Eh. I'm not hurt. But that monster. Eh dash. W-H what is going on? Luo Bing, it's all right now. This monster. When did this monster become like this? You will know in the future, there is no need to understand now. Yes, young lord. Since young lord said that there is no need for me to know now, I will not worry about it. I trust the young lord. Just now. I did sense the aura of the three ancient demonic beasts sealed within the purple moon cult altar. But they've clearly already become altar orbs and were absorbed into Luo Bing's body. What kind of secrets are hidden in her body? I remember that when I first took her in as a disciple, there was a notification about triggering a side quest. Brother, the Sword Sovereign said that Luo Bing might have come from Luzhou's White Deer Forest. Did you find any leads? Dong Li said those words in the past too. I must go to the White Deer Forest to find out more. But do have a good harvest of fourth rank monster hearts in this trip. Once my initial goals have been achieved, I can activate the Silo Grade Sword Embryo Forging Blueprint at any time. Besides, I have so many monster corpses, bones, and pills, which seem to be good treasures and may be useful in the future. Young Lord, I think she's coming out. Ah, she doesn't have any feathers or clothes. Luo Bing, give her a set of clothes. Yes. Damn it. She got ahead of me. I haven't even let young lord see me naked yet. A strange desire to win unfolds. Th thank you. When I broke out of my cocoon and was reborn this time, I actually broke through to the fifth rank. I really want to thank the both of you. What kind of weird clothes did that girl bring? Eh, that, that is. The prince of the black-winged eagle clan? Prince? So he was the one who wanted to capture me and steal my cocoon power. But he's the prince of the Black-Winged Eagle Clan and has even changed his form, becoming extremely powerful. How did he end up dead? My young lord protected you. Thank you, Lord Cultivator, for saving me. Please come with me and take refuge in my clan. He is the only son of the Black King of the Black-Winged Eagle Clans. Now that he has died, the king will definitely come to seek revenge. Are you trying to bite the hand that feeds you? I would not dare. Lord Cultivator. I. Young Lord, isn't she trying to help us? The Black-Winged Eagle Clan do not even know about us, but what they do know is that their so-called prince was chasing after this Jade Falcon. Now that the prince is dead, they will naturally come after the Jade Falcons for revenge. And not after two random human cultivators who came from who knows where. And you wanted to use my power to help resist the Blackwing Clan who would soon come for revenge, am I right? Lord Cultivator, you are very observant. 
I dare not to deceive you. But if Lord Cultivator does not help us, our Jade Falcon clan will definitely be wiped out. Lord Cultivator, please save my clan. But why should I save your clan? Saving you and protecting you was nothing but a whim of mine. If you agree to help us, I am willing to represent my clan to give you the treasure of the Jade Falcons. You have an extremely big opportunity to receive a special item of the Jade Falcon clan. That's it, this is what I want. Humans get motivated by benefits after all. Young Lord, she's so pitiful, why don't we help her to the end? Sigh. Since my disciple has a soft heart, I will agree to your request. Pretending to sigh. Thank you, Lord Cultivator. Reporting to Lord B.L. Black King. The aura of the soldiers that Sir General has let out have all disappeared. I'm afraid. I'm afraid. You're afraid that they are all dead? This little one dares not speak such nonsense. A mere jade falcon dares to kill my son? It seems. Like this matter is not so simple. Black Winged Eagle Clan Fing LV7. I shall find out the truth personally. No matter who they are, those that were involved in this matter shall all be buried with my son. This is the place where my son's aura disappeared. Not only does this place have my son's aura, but it also has the aura of many races. Yet, there's not a single corpse. Wait. That is. The aura of the ancient demonic beasts. There's three. And one of them is actually the aura of a dragon. To think that the Jade Falcons colluded with those disasters. Since you Jade Falcon clan are working together with them, do not blame me for destroying all of you. But, the ancient demonic beasts are powerful, my clan is not a match for them. In that case, I shall unite all the Eagle clans in this area and exterminate them together. Jade Falcon Clan Settlement Jade Falcon Clan Territory The princess has gone missing. Our Jade Falcon Clan cannot live without a leader. Her Majesty the Queen has fallen, and the princess is missing. Could the heavens be trying to destroy our clan? Buck up, we have to choose a new falcon monarch to lead our clan and survive. That's easier said than done, who is the most suited to become our leader? That's right, if the one chosen is not as capable as the princess, it might be better to search for her and get her back as soon as possible. Makes sense, why don't we split up and search for her now? Maybe. From the looks of things, I'm afraid that she won't be coming back. When the queen fell, she left the clan and I saw her heading towards the territory of the Black-Winged Eagle clan. Perhaps she saw that the queen was going to fall, so she defected to the Black-Winged Eagle clan first and is now on her way to destroy our clan with those people. She has already abandoned us Jade Falcons. Chi Yu, don't spew nonsense, how could the princess do such a thing? That's right, Chi Yu, where did your information come from? But what if the princess really was a traitor? What are we going to do? Are we just going to stand around and do nothing? That's why, the first thing we must do is to select a truly capable falcon monarch to lead our clan to survive. Since the monarch must be capable, it is natural to prioritize the one with the highest cultivation realm. Now that the queen has fallen, and the princess has become a traitor, I, Chi Yu, am the only one left in the entire Jade Falcon who has stepped into the fifth rank. I believe all of you should know that only a powerful monarch can protect you all, am I right? That may be the case, but... We still are not sure that the princess is really a traitor. But it is indeed true that there is no one with a rank higher than Chi Yu in our clan. There is nothing really wrong with her becoming the new Falcon Monarch. But, these cowards, if I pressure them even more, they will probably kneel before me and beg me to become the new Falcon Monarch. Your Majesty the Queen, after suppressing me and protecting her for so many years, isn't this still the result in the end? If you want to blame someone, blame your daughter for being too foolish and believing my lies. How can the Black-Winged Eagle Clan have a medicinal herb that can lengthen the lifespan of a Jade Falcon? 
The Jade Falcon has been protected by you for so long that they have forgotten how to survive as a monster. But, I will make them all remember it. If I want to live well, I can't hide in this valley and live a meek life. I have to get out and kill other monster clans and occupy their territories. Only by gaining the bloody experience of battle will our Jade Falcon clan survive for generations with prosperity. No. Her Highness the Princess will never become a traitor. She's the only one who can succeed the Queen. Chi Yo, you are slandering and spreading false rumors. The princess has no reason to abandon us. Hey you. Noisy scum, you dare? The Jade Falcons have become weak. It's all because the previous queen protected all of you too much. Remember this, from this day forth, I.D. will be the new queen of the Jade Falcons. Those who refuse to accept this will end up like that rock. This Chi you really came prepared. She is a warmongering bastard. She only pretended to be kind because she was constantly pressured by the queen. Now that the queen is gone and the princess is not here, there is no one who can suppress her. She is really powerful. Even Hei Yu who is beside her is at the peak of the fourth rank. We will never acknowledge you as the new queen. Only her highness the princess can succeed the queen. Chi Yu, you are not worthy. Oh no. That kid is courting death. He's the princess's subordinate and very loyal to her, but... To think that he will say those words, does he not want to live anymore? Chi Yu will definitely not let him go. Hey you, it looks like you are still ignorant of the current situation. Let this queen wake you up. Say it one more time, am I not worthy? Since someone wanted to stand out, I shall use him to show my force to the whole clan. Only the powerful and loyal ones should be kept anyways. The rest of the weaklings are nothing but burdens. I shall show all of you the outcome of going against your queen. Her Majesty the Queen will never bully fellow clansmen like you. You are not worthy of becoming our queen. Not worthy. And never will. Then die. Foolish child. Why did he do such a thing? Sigh, it is a pity that Her Majesty the Queen has fallen, otherwise, this wouldn't have happened. If only. If only. If only. Her Highness the Princess would come back. H.M.? What's going on? Slaughtering innocents indiscriminately, you lack the heart of a queen. Chi Yo, what are you doing to my clan? It's Her Highness. She's back. Yu Yu didn't run away. That's great. I knew you wouldn't abandon us. Chi Yo is indeed spreading rumors. There is no way you would defect to the Black Winged Eagle clan. She's actually still alive, and the Black Winged Eagles didn't kill her. Bitch, but do you think that you can become the queen after coming back when you are just at the fourth rank? Ling Yu, how are you? Your Highness, I'm alright. I knew that you would come back. Cough, cough. Your Highness, Chi Yu took the opportunity when you weren't around. To make herself the queen. She even spread false rumors about you defecting to the Black Winged Eagle Clan. Cough, cough, cough. I know, Ling Yu, stop talking and rest. MHM. Princess. To think that you would collude with humans and attempt to harm the lives of your own clan. A person like you is unworthy of being the queen of Jade Falcons. If you have the ability, defeat me in a fair fight, and I will accept you as our queen. Even Hey you can't break this strange restraining technique. That human cultivator is quite capable. I have to put the princess in a bad light first. As long as that human cultivator doesn't interfere, I will definitely defeat her. After all. She's only at fourth rank. Fine, I accept the duel. Lord Cultivator, please release the bindings and let us have a fight to decide our fate. Have you thought through it carefully? This is clearly a trap, but there is no easy way out of it. 
If she doesn't agree to it, she will lose face in front of her clan and will even have the infamy of colluding with humans. Eh, when did I become a villain? I've thought about it carefully. If I can't even defeat her, how can I protect my Jade Falcon clan? If I lose, then I'm unfit to be a queen. Lord Cultivator, please fulfill my request. The character of the princess is a hundred times better than Chi Yu. Only the princess is worthy of being our queen. But her highness is only at the fourth rank. She's definitely not a match for Chi Yu, who is at the fifth rank. This fool fell into my trap as expected. A mere fourth rank wants to fight with a fifth rank? Stop dreaming. Besides, I have something I want you to do. Unlike her, I will do anything to win. Since that's the case, this venerable one shall follow your will. Perhaps she has already considered carefully, there is no need for me to interfere too much. After all, my enemy has yet to appear. No wonder the princess colluded with human cultivators, that human is indeed very good looking. Even a princess would be attracted to him. He's really beautiful. There's actually a human more beautiful than a jade falcon. To think that there is a human with an appearance that is out of this world. St. Stop saying nonsense. Chi Yo. If I defeat you, you shall leave the clan. And never return for eternity. If you lose, I'm not going to give you a chance to leave. If this was in the past, I would naturally not be your match. But right now, I've reached the fifth rank. Fifth rank. Without a solid foundation, it's nothing but empty power. Then I shall let you experience whether my fifth rank power is real or fake. So powerful. So this is a battle between fifth ranks. After a Jade Falcon steps into the fifth rank, its speed and strength is totally different from the fourth rank. Young lord, aren't we being a bit too relaxed? A fight of this level is no different from a theatrical performance. It's not serious. More tea. The theatrical performance? But I can't even see their movements clearly. If I was in the fight, I would have definitely lost. Don't mind it too much. You can't see their movements clearly at this time because you haven't broken through the fourth rank yet. Once you break through the fourth rank, fighting fifth rank monsters will be a piece of cake. Thank you, young lord, for clearing my worries. Young lord is caring as always, adoring him. Is the best thing I've ever done in my life. Look, the victor will soon be decided. Protect the children. Stop running aimlessly. Find somewhere to hide. Chi Yu, you've lost. Her Highness won. That's great. Her Highness won. Chi Yo can't become the queen. There's hope for our Jade Falcon clan. As expected of the princess of the Jade Falcons with the noblest and purest blood, you are indeed powerful after reaching the fifth rank. I lost. I won't return to the clan ever again. Fine. Since you agree, leave right now. Otherwise. Hey, hey. You don't have to rush me. I know what to do. Hey yo, it's the queen's coffin. What is she doing? The queen's coffin is being taken away. Hey yo, put down the queen's coffin right now. That is extremely disrespectful to the deceased. You dare. Ha 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 ha. You want to be queen? Then I shall take away your mother's corpse and let those despicable demonic beasts eat her up. I'll let those lowly demonic beasts step all over your mother's corpse. You must be feeling terrible. Ha ha ha. Stop. If you dare to chase after him, I will tell Hey you to throw the coffin down and smash it into pieces. Princess, I want you to announce to everyone right now that you will make me the queen of the Jade Falcons. Chi Yo, you've also received my mother's kindness. How can you do this? Are you really going to be this ungrateful? This is bad. The princess is very filial. 
Chi Yu is so unscrupulous, if she really becomes the queen, our clan will be finished. How can Chi Yu be so despicable? At that height, the queen's body and coffin will be shattered into pieces. I hate that we're so weak and are unable to help her highness. Princess, you just have to agree. I am very loyal and affectionate. But if you don't agree by the time I count to three, don't even think about seeing the queen's body ever again. Mother. Quickly make a decision. Three. Young lord, that woman is very troublesome, should we? No rush, she hasn't even asked us for help yet. If we help her recklessly, it might produce the opposite effect. I agree to your request. You are indeed loyal and affectionate, but words are empty, so swear by the Jade Falcon God statue. I swear to the Jade Falcon God that I, Chin Yu, am willing to give the position of the Queen of the Jade Falcons to Chi Yo. If I go against my words, I will be punished by heaven and earth. Princess, you can't. How did it turn out like this? Chi Yo, how can you be fifty shameless? Bastard. We don't want Chi Yu to be the queen. We refuse. Your Highness, if Her Majesty the Queen is with the Jade Falcon God, she will definitely not agree with your actions. Cough, cough, cough. Young Master, are we still not going to take action? No, it's not the right time. I recall that Peppa Pig looks like this, but now that I look at it again, it's quite abstract. All of you. Shut up. Chi Yu. Return my mother's body to me now. Of course. I won't. Hey yo, take it away. Yes. Chi Yu, what are you planning to do? Why did you go against your words? I want to make you suffer. I want to make you despair. You think that you can defeat me and get everything? In your dreams. This is bad. Although I defeated her just now, my injuries are severe. Even though I was the only fifth rank great monster in the entire clan, because I wasn't of pure Jade Falcon blood, your mother never treated me as a true part of the clan. I want to make all of you pay. Let me tell you another thing. The story about the Black Winged Eagle clan having a life extending elixir was all made up by me. My goal was to trick you into leaving the clan and look for a life extending elixir for the dying queen so that it will be easy for me to take action. What? What do you mean? That's right, your mother could have lasted for a while longer, but I... I strangled her to death, watching as her breathing gradually slowed to a stop. Moreover, the Black Wing Eagle Clan has always coveted our clan's talents. If I trick you into searching for a medicine in their territory, you will definitely die. This was a strategy that kills two birds with one stone. chi -yo. I will kill you. Ha 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 ha. You want to kill me? With your current state? Hey yo, come back and kill her with me. No answer. Hey you. Did you not hear me? Hey you. Mother. There's another red jade falcon bastard over there. Kill her. What's going on? Why are the three great eagle clans appearing here at the same time, and... That gigantic black-winged eagle, that's the Black King. I have to run. Today is the day the Jade Falcon clan will be destroyed. Mother. Mother. No. No. It's about time. Mother. The little bird has learned the first lesson of entering the real world, and that is LTO recognized reality. This Jade Falcon clan is indeed too naive. But, the retribution of the evildoer will be swift. Help. Help. No. Ah, dash. Though those guys are the Black Winged Eagle Clan, Blue Winged Eagle Clan, and the White Winged Eagle Clan. Why have the three great eagle clans gathered together to come to my tiny jade falcon territory? I didn't sense the aura of any ancient demonic beasts. Have they hidden them? 
hiding in the dark to deliver a thunderous blow. This is indeed a method that only bastards like the demonic beasts can come up with. Wait. On that human girl's body. There are actually hidden auras of three ancient demonic beasts. Luo Bing, did you see that gigantic eagle? Yes, young lord, what about it? It... It seems to be looking at me. If I guessed correctly, it should have sensed the aura of the ancient demonic beasts in you. According to the common bestial habits of the monster race and the demonic beasts, there's a high chance that it wants to devour you. Huh? Young lord. Th then what should we do? The ancient demonic beasts have been discovered to be residing in that human girl's body. The one who captures that human girl alive will be rewarded with ten fifth rank monster cores. The Black King is very generous. Ten fifth rank monster cores can help me break through to the six th rank directly. That human cultivator beside her fifteen just at the fifth rank. We will definitely capture her. What can we do? Pour some tea first. Eh? Air. Yes, young lord. What else can we do when facing a 7th rank great monster? 5th rank great completion. We can only break through first. Breaking through during battle, and it's 7 layers in one go. But even so, he's just a 5th rank great completion trash. I have many powerful 6th ranks within my 3 colors eagle clan warriors. Same rank human cultivators are naturally weaker than monsters, furthermore, my warriors have the number advantage. What's the point of breaking through now? The 10 5th rank monster cores are mine. Nonsense. Those monster cores are mine. A mere 5th rank great completion human cultivator is the same as an ant. Young lord, they are coming. A. M. H. M. As expected of young master, even in such dangerous situations, he's still so calm. In reality. Promotion mission. Promotion mission breakthrough the fifth rank. Kill one sixth rank monster or three fifth rank great completion monsters mission rewards. Different rewards will be given based on the mission. Sure enough, the mission will fit the mission based on the current situation. The orange grade promotion mission this time is just to kill a 6th rank great monster. Then if I kill that 7th rank big black eagle, I wonder what kind of evaluation the system will give. I'm quite looking forward to it. But this Jade Falcon clan is indeed a weak monster clan. But you possess a powerful inherited talent, and I've taken a liking to your princess, so I'll lend you a helping hand. You eagle clan rats, if you want to kill this venerable one, then catch up to me first. Aya. How laughable. To think that a human would challenge us in speed. Brothers, let's show him. Show him the true power of our eagle clans. That human cultivator is genuinely trying to help me. He's diverting the eagle clan away from our territory to not involve my clan. To help us to this extent, is he really just after my clan's treasure? This is clearly an unfair exchange. Young lord, they are catching up. Give me your hand. Young lord? This. This is the first time I have held hands with young lord. This is not the time to be hesitant. Yes. Luo Bing's innocent desire is unique. The desire is just a facade to attract Lu Chao Ge, but at her core, she remains pure. Hold on tight, this venerable one will teach these monsters a lesson about what is fast and furious. It's still not far enough from the Jade Falcon territory. A battle with the seventh rank will definitely be explosive. I have to get further. It's the wind attribute formation engraved by Master. To think that it can be used on a flying vessel. Hermit Saint. Master is simply an escape genius. To think that she can even think of such a use for a formation. That human actually increased his speed. Brothers. We must not lose to him. Speed up. All of you speed up with everything you have. Don't even think about surpassing us eagles in speed. Even if I die, I want to let him witness the speed of our eagle clan. 
Being surpassed by Lu Chao Ge in their area of expertise, this group of eagles has now gone mad. To increase their speed, they actually pressurized their heart to the point of explosion in order to supply more blood. As expected of my eagle warriors, they seem to have exploded their hearts in order to fly even faster. The monster race is truly crazy, but what a pity. How can a body outspeed an artifact? Where are you trying to run to, human? If you give us that girl and run, this venerable king will spare your life. I know you. You are Lu Chao Ge, recently famous across the four continents of Tianxian. It wants. Me? But. Why? Oh, since you know this venerable one, it makes things easier. You should understand that this venerable one never negotiates with anyone and I would definitely not hand over my own disciple to exchange for this venerable one's life. Young lord. But she killed my son. And she also killed my clan's warriors. Shouldn't a blood debt be paid with blood? About that, you shouldn't blame her. H.M.? This venerable one killed them. How bold. I originally wanted to spare your life on account of the Sword Sovereign, but since you want to die, this venerable king shall grant your wish. Your son was doing evil and even wanted this venerable one's life, so I naturally killed him. But this venerable one didn't expect you to be even more pathetic than him. You knew that I was your enemy, yet you didn't dare to act against me because you fear the Sword Sovereign. This venerable one really looks down on trash like you who bullies the weak but fears the strong. Lu Chao Ji, this venerable king will crush your bones and turn you into ashes. Wrath from humiliation. What's even more laughable was that on the surface, you wanted to take revenge for your son, but once you sensed the power of the ancient demonic beasts in my disciple's body, you immediately changed your mind. From what I can see, your son is less important than the power of the three ancient demonic beasts. The son is hot-tempered and brainless, while the father is self-serving. Truly a classic case of fatherly kindness and filial piety. So it's because of the power of the three color orbs I absorbed. Shut up. I will destroy this place so that there's nowhere you can hide. Lu Chao Ji. From this day forth, your name shall be wiped from the entire Tianqian. Oh no. That's Lord Black King's famous ultimate move. I cruel eagle Black Sunni. Run. That move will annihilate anyone below the seventh rank. The last time the Black King used this move, he destroyed the entire Grey Mad Leopard clan. Apparently, not a single corpse was left. Run. Run. Chu Man Immortal, open. Young Lord's domain is beautiful as always. You aren't going to be able to handle what happens next. I will use the fastest speed to fly the vessel out of here. Hold on tight. Be you but young lord, that is a 7th rank monster king. Why don't we escape first? Hide your aura and don't bump into any eagles. Young lord. From the moment I stepped into the Jade Falcon Clan's territory, I've already opened Human Immortal and it has finished accumulating. Sure enough, the seventh rank is hard to deal with. If I don't open Immortal Ascension, it would be impossible. Chu Man Immortal Immortal Ascensioni. Lu Chao Ge, disappear. Young Lord. Don't even think about surviving my Black Sunni if you are below the 7th rank and in the radius of the move. This is the fate of infuriating this venerable king. If the Sword Sovereign blames me, I'll just escape to the Sea of Chaos. What can he do to me? Oh? Escaping to the Sea of Chaos, are you thinking of getting support from the demonic beasts? My monster race and the demonic beasts come from the same origin. Getting support from them is. Wait, who's talking? Lu Chao Ge, you are not dead. 
Of course I'm not dead. After all, the person who should die is you. Can't be cut? Who do you think I am? This venerable king is a seventh rank great monster. It's simply laughable that you believe yourself to be capable of slashing my body with your puny strength. You're indeed quite capable, but that's all there is to it. What sharp claws, he's stronger than Ning Jinshan, who just came back from the dead. Lu Chao Ge, this venerable king knows that you want to help the Jade Falcon clan, which is why you intentionally led me and my clan to this place. I originally wanted to give some respect to the Sword Sovereign and not fight with you, but now, this venerable king won't give that respect anymore. I will destroy the Jade Falcon clan right in front of your eyes. Ning Jinshan was revived from the dead, although he had the buff of the Soul Jades, he was in a very weak state, his true power wasn't even at the 7th rank. Besides, my water counters his fire. Right now, this guy is a bona fide 7th rank, I have to level up my power again to kill it. System, use that one, swordsmanship, point which I haven't used yet. Okay. Swordsmanship. Current, 7 points. Swordsmanship can increase the power of Sword Dao by 10%. I originally wanted to save it and use it all at once, but I have no choice but to use it now. Furthermore, I'm now at level 60, and Never Knight can be upgraded. Upgrade Never Knight. Beginning to inject EXP into Never Knight, LV53. Never Knight has unlocked a new unique effect. It has unlocked a new unique effect. Inspect. Nevernight Blue Grade Upper Tier. Current level, LV60 required EXP to level up, unable to level up slash, injected zero. Sword damage increase, 60%, next grade, unable to upgrade. Unique effect triggered, water affinity, when the sword is imbued with water, increase damage by 15%, decrease sword weight by 15%. Unique effect triggered, Monster Slayer, increased damage dealt to monsters and demonic beasts by 10%. Awakened Sword Spirit, none. Owner, Lu Chao Ji. Is, never night, responding to my intent. Although the new unique effect is just yellow grade, in this current situation, it's equal to purple grade. Good sword, once I slay that black eagle, this venerable one will upgrade you to purple grade sword embryo. As expected of a 7th rank eagle monster, its speed far exceeds me, but... Rain, come. In the rain, I can use it to increase the speed of Never Night. In a battle between masters, even the slightest mistake can lead to a difference of a thousand miles. His water attribute can actually control the weather. But this won't affect this venerable king's speed. This venerable king wants you to have a taste of hopelessness and despair. The pain of my son's death, I'll make you feel it too. Is everyone alright? That human cultivator helped us by leading the eagle clans away, and even helped me secure the queen's crystal coffin. Once they are back, we must properly thank them. But that black king is a 7th rank monster king, is that human cultivator really his match? If the queen is together with the falcon god, she will definitely help him. Please, mother. Please, your majesty. Help that human. Your majesty. Mother. Jade falcons, your falcon god won't be able to protect you. All of you shall have the honor of having this venerable king destroy your clan. It's the Black King, he came back. How did this happen? Could that human cultivator be? That can't be it, he's so easily. It's over, our Jade Falcon Clan. Is finished. Be buried together with my son. Wah. Wah. Help. Wah. Th this is a seventh rank. This is a monster king. How do we win against him? How do we win? 
Mother. Mother. What should I do? Woo, mother, Chi Yu bullied me again. Mother, please help me woo. I am the queen, how can I favor you alone? You're the princess, you must be strong. You wanted to become the bravest warrior in the Jade Falcon clan. If someone bullied you, or if someone bullied our clan, what should you do? Mother has taught you this before. That. That. I remember. If someone hits me, I'll hit them back. If someone hits my clan, I will beat them up viciously. That's right. Beat those who dare to bully my Jade Falcon clan to death. Remember this well. You must beat them to death. I will beat those who dare to bully my Jade Falcon clan to death. Run. Run. Help. Wah. Ah. My wing. Quickly protect the princess. Where is the princess? It's, it's the princess. The princess wants to fight with that monster. Princess. Your Highness. I will beat those who dare to bully my Jade Falcon clan to death. Run. Everyone run. I will stall him. All of you run. Princess. She is fighting with her life on the line for us. She's fighting the powerful Black-Winged Eagle King for us. Are we destined to forever cower under the wings of the Queen and the Princess? Are we going to watch our Princess die so that we cowards can live? Fifth rank beginning stage trash. Turn into dust. Arg. Fifty week, die. Mother, I can't do it, but I. You knew it was impossible, yet you still did it. You are a lot like your mother, not bad at all. Mother. Your Majesty the Queen. We're here. Queen. You guys. We will live and die with you, your majesty. The Jade Falcon Clan will no longer live a meek life. From today onwards, you will be our new queen. You guys. You all don't even have many fourth ranks. A clan like yours are really like ants. Ants should accept the fate of ants. Shoot feather blades with all your power. We must protect the queen and let her leave safely. Yes. No, all of you run. Run. Don't. Stop them. Thank you, your majesty, for your concern, but that is their glory. Glory. New. Disappear, ants. Looks like this venerable one. Wasn't late. Th that is. That silhouette, it must be the human cultivator. He wasn't killed by the Black King? Why did he choose to come back and face a 7th rank great monster? Human cultivators have always viewed monsters as enemies for him to return after leaving, especially when he's facing such a powerful enemy. Lord Cultivator, are you alright? Firstly, this venerable one is very powerful. Second, this venerable one never goes against his words. When he agreed to help me only after I promised to give him the clan's treasures, I thought he was just a greedy human cultivator who only looks after his own benefits. Now that he has done so much for my clan, how are mere treasures enough? To repay his kindness? My Jade Falcon clan is very weak if the Lord Cultivator really saved us. I, Chin Yu, and the Jade Falcon clan will repay his kindness for generations. Lu Chao Ji, you came at the right time. This venerable king will beat you half dead and let you watch them being killed one by one. Retreat with your clan, this venerable one will deal with this alone. Yes. Everyone, follow me. It's good that Lord Cultivator is helping us, but should we just abandon him and leave? I have faith in Lord Cultivator. This isn't a hasty escape, but to not burden that great lord. 
from today onwards, everyone shall cultivate diligently. We must regain our former strength. When that time comes, we will be able to help the Lord Cultivator. Yes. Your Majesty. You bastard. Why are you suddenly so much stronger? What kind of monster are you? This amount of leveling can be achieved by drinking a few sips of water. There's not a single truth in this human's words. In that case, this venerable king will not give you any mercy. Trying to escape? Does the monster king only know how to run? And take this. The sword energy consumes a gigantic amount of spiritual energy. Why do you seem to have an infinite supply of it? A fifth rank like you should have already been fully depleted. That is because this venerable one is using your spiritual energy, of course. What's going on? My spiritual energy is actually flowing away constantly. I can't stop it. You dare to be distracted when you are fighting this venerable one? How interesting. To think that he could already slash my body in this short amount of time. This venerable one's sword wasn't sharp enough earlier and couldn't break your defense, but now, this venerable one's sword is honed and accurate. The consecutive upgrades have given me the strength to fight him. Unique effect triggered, D, water affinity, when the sword is imbued with water, increase damage by 15%, decrease sword weight by 15%. Unique effect triggered, Monster Slayer, increased damage dealt to monsters TS and demonic beasts by 10%. Duh. The monster race's body and racial talents may be powerful, but they don't cultivate like humans do and don't have a domain to awaken. This venerable king has lived for a thousand years, only you have dared to harm this venerable king. That's because you were lucky, if you bumped into the elders from Lujo's sacred ground house of houses, your bird head would have been long gone. What makes you think this venerable king has no backing in the house of houses? Oh, if you have some relationship with the house of houses, that would make things difficult. There's no use being afraid after finding that out now. This venerable king will show you the true divine ability of the monster race. Black Winged Eagle Divine Ability Power of the Azure Tempest So you are the descendant of the ancient monster god Azure Tempest, no wonder, no wonder. Although the Azure Tempest is also a divine beast, it is one level lower than the phoenix which possesses the power of flames and rebirth. But even so, the pure blood lineage of the Azure Tempest clan, even at birth, is at the level of a seventh rank monster king, it is definitely powerful. That's right, the Black-Winged Eagle Clan is the descendant of the monster god Azure Tempest. Our speed is unparalleled. Unparalleled? Just now, your disciples and grand disciples couldn't even catch up to this venerable one. Even you only managed to catch up by relying on the difference in ranks. This venerable king can't be bothered to argue with a dead man. H.M.? Compared to his speed just now, he's three times faster. The racial talents of the monster race are indeed powerful. It's not over. Lu Chao Ge, it's impressive that you can force this venerable king to use my divine ability. But that's all there is to you. After this venerable king tears off your head, I will make it into a drinking cup and you will accompany this venerable king forever. So barbaric. But, do you even have the ability? We shall see. Survive this punch if you can, Lu Chao Ge. Fine, then this venerable one shall use my face to take that punch. Fifty arrogant. You deserve to die. W.H. Watts going on. Why can't I move? I gave you a chance, but you're completely useless. Lu Chao Ge, what did you do to me? Nothing much, it's just that all of your spiritual energy has been sucked dry by me. What's going on? I don't have any spiritual energy at all. Don't waste your effort, if it wasn't for my water supporting you, you would have already fallen. W.H. What kind of monster are you? 
Why? Why are you so much stronger than the rumors? I am a seventh rank great monster king. Actually, this venerable one isn't really that powerful. If you had truly tried to kill me at the start, you would have won. This venerable one's domain can constantly drain the opponent's spiritual energy, but it's not fast. You wasted a lot of time for me. Adding on to the fact that you spend a large amount of spiritual energy to cast your techniques and change your form, it resulted in you being drained of spiritual energy. If this venerable one had to kill you by brute forcing it, it would probably take a lot of effort. Of course, it's not that I can't do it, it's just that it's not effective. In that case, let's end this. Wait. My backing is one of the 72 peak masters in House of Houses, do you know the consequences of killing me? It worked. Even if he's Lu Chao GE, he still fears the power of the House of Houses. Actually, I have a question. Why is your black-winged eagle clan chasing after that Jade Falcon princess relentlessly? Besides, the Jade Falcon clan's territory is very small and is very far from yours. There should not be any conflicts. That's naturally because of the innate divine ability fathered Nirvana that only the royalty of the Jade Falcon possess. Although I have stepped into the seventh rank, my lifespan is not more than a thousand years. Now that my end is nearing, I wanted to obtain a monster core from the Jade Falcon royalty and steal that divine ability to extend my life for another thousand years. But it was a shame that the Jade Falcon clan hit too well. Their queen's powerful array talent has concealed the entire clan so well that we've never been able to find them. Until that one day, when a Jade Falcon Clan princess actually came to my Black Winged Eagle Mountains to pick medicinal herbs. She was only at the fourth rank, and my son could have easily captured her, but... You ruined my plans and even killed my son. So monsters can devour monster cores and steal the respective innate divine ability? That's not the point. Let this venerable king go quickly... Otherwise, when that peak master from the House of Houses finds out, you will definitely not have a good ending. So noisy, this venerable one has fought with the disciple of the Judge of Death before, and you think your peak master will scare me? You. Shut up. What? He's still alive without a brain. I see. It's just turning back into its original form. Such a massive body. There must be many treasures. Oh right, there's also that guy's monster pill in his body. Promotion mission break through the 5th rank. The requirement of killing a 6th rank monster or 3 5th rank great completion monsters has been exceeded. Evaluation mission in progress. It will be completed in 12 hours. You've killed the Black Winged Eagle King, LV-71, and received 20 million EXP. The evaluation will be completed in 12 hours? This system is getting laggier. The Black Winged Eagle King was also at 7th rank, but he only gave 20 million EXP, which was one third less than Ning Jianchan. But the Monster Clan lacks martial techniques and can't awaken domains. They can only rely on their innate divine ability, so they're indeed not that powerful. Then, if someone gave the monster race martial techniques and let them awaken domains while at the same time possessing innate divine ability, won't they become extremely powerful? The calamity is coming and it's good to have extra help, but I wonder if they can cultivate like humans do? Your Majesty, all the clan members have been settled and the entrances are protected by the protection array set up by the former queen. Although the array is fading, it should be fine for a few days. A few days is enough, Lord Cultivator will win. Go and comfort the elderly and the young, don't let anyone lose their composure. I will stand guard here. Yes. Mother, I didn't expect you to still protect the clan even after you have turned into feathers. Compared to you, I'm truly. The sky is turning dark again. Don't tell me the Black King is back? Then is Lord Cultivator. I it's really the Black King. I have to inform everyone and tell them to hide deeper into the cave. Don't be scared, it's this venerable one. It's Lord Cultivator's voice. Lord Cultivator. Lord Cultivator, I knew you would win. 
MHM, this venerable one has killed the black-winged eagle king. Thank you, Lord Cultivator, for helping my clan. I, Ching Yu, will give you the treasure of the Jade Falcons as promised. Please accept it. This little bird is pretty smart. This item is the treasure of the Jade Falcon clan. Lord Cultivator, please take this. HSS. A feather, is this the treasure of the clan? How do you use this treasure? I, I don't know either, but my mother knew how to use it. It's just that. It's just that before she could tell me. She. Only the previous queen knew how to use this item. What a pity, what a pity, this treasure has turned into trash. You've obtained the Jade Falcon Clan Special Item Jade Immolation Array Technique. Do you wish to activate it? Great job system. Activate. This is. It looks like this is the item's true form. Jade Immolation Array Technique. Purple Grade Lower Tier. Purple Grade Lower Tier, this array technique is indeed a treasure. In the Sword Sect, only people at the level of Direct Disciples can cultivate this technique. As for those intermediate hundred sects or the lower hundred sects, if they see this, they will immediately fight tooth and nail for it. But Little Lizzy already has the purple grade upper tier formation technique, this purple grade lower tier array. Forget it, I'll make a copy for her. That black winged eagle king said that the previous queen of the Jade Falcon clan is extraordinary at array techniques, this item is probably the reason for it. This girl doesn't seem to have the slightest intention of coveting it. It looks like this venerable one judged her correctly. When I first analyzed her, the system actually gave extra information. Chin Yu. Jade Falcon Monster Race. Level LV-41. Enlightenment. 7. Core Bone. 7. Luck. 8. Temperament. 8. Array Technique Aptitude. 9. Evaluation, a brave and pure pure-blooded Jade Falcon. Apart from that information about being able to obtain a unique item, there are also her base attributes. Among them, what I care about the most is, temperament and Kari technique aptitude. For a monster to have an 8 in temperament, which was even specifically indicated by the system, that is something extraordinary. I further analyzed other monsters and this, temperament, attribute didn't pop out. That's why, from that moment on, I had the intention of accepting her as a disciple. After all, to deal with the Tianxian Calamity, the strength of the monsters is indispensable. I originally thought that monsters have nothing to do with demonic beasts, but that Black King said that he could escape to the Sea of Chaos to escape from the Sword Sovereign. If what he said is true, then there's definitely a close relationship between monsters and demonic beasts. Perhaps the Jade Falcons can become spies for me? Ching Yu, this item is called Jade Immolation Array Technique. It is extremely powerful. Are you not hesitant to give it to me? You are the savior of my clan. I won't be able to repay you even if I were shattered into pieces, let alone with this minor technique. But I do have a favor to ask Lord Cultivator. What is it? She doesn't want the technique, yet she wants my help. Is she perhaps trying to ask for it in a roundabout manner? I don't know your name and I've always called you Lord Cultivator. It doesn't seem right. Er, so she just wanted to ask for my name. This venerable one is M.O. Sex Sect Leader, Lu Chao Ge. The Jade Falcon Clan rarely goes out into the world and it was chaotic just now. It's normal for her to not know my name. If it was someone else asking this question, I would have thought he was trying to pick a fight. Who doesn't know the illustrious name of Lu Chao Ge? Lu Chao Ge. M.O. Sect. What a nice name. Senior Lu, this junior has one more request. Chin Yu brazenly requests for sect leader Lu to accept me as a disciple. Please teach me the way of Dao and give me the power to protect the Jade Falcons. If you don't agree, Chin Yu will count out here until she dies. The determination is quite strong. But she isn't very smart. If it were someone else, I would see this as emotional blackmail. But this venerable one wanted to take you in anyways. 
No need to count out anymore. The disciple acceptance ceremony only requires three of them. D does this mean? That you accept me as a disciple? It's not me. I'm accepting you on behalf of my sister. I have a sister. She is M.O. Sex Elder Lu Dong Li. From today onwards, you will be her named disciple. Achu. Is someone talking about me? Thank you, Marshal Uncle. Although I can't become his disciple, getting into M.O. Sect is a good thing. I will give both the Jade Immolation Array Technique and the Cultivation Technique Care Condensing Technique to you. Practice well and don't slack off. I will bear Marshal Uncle's teachings in mind. That's right, these techniques. Can I learn them with my clan? Only choose those with aptitude. Yes. These techniques are purple grade. If I give them to those with no aptitude, it's basically useless. HM? A red flashing notification? MO Sec Disciple, Luo Bing, is in danger. Finally, a pop up notification. Actually, I separated from Luo Bing because I had another plan in my heart. If I let Luo Bing fall into danger, it might trigger her to integrate the power of the ancient demonic beasts faster. I'm busy, so I'll take my leave first. Even so, I cannot allow Luo Bing to be in real danger. Farewell, Marshal Uncle. With this, I'll make the Jade Falcon Clan impossible to bully in the future. We won't hide and cower any longer. But, Marshal Uncle is really handsome. It's fortunate I didn't become his disciple because I still have the chance to. Fight me one by one if you can. What kind of skill is it to gang up on me? With the power of the ancient demonic beasts in you, who would dare fight you one and own? As long as we don't kill her directly, the power of the ancient demonic beasts in her won't be activated. This is what we learned in exchange for our brother's life. The three colored orbs in my body have some kind of powerful energy, but when they appear, it's very hard for me to control them and I can't do anything but let the energy surge out of me. Besides, every time they explode, my body becomes weaker. They have already learned how to deal with me and won't try to kill me anymore. If this carries on, I will definitely die. And I don't know what the young lord's situation is. I he's not alive anymore, then what's the point of me? The point of me living is to avenge young lord. Even if he's a seventh rank monster king, I, Luo Bing, will take revenge for the young lord and fight him to the death. I will try to control them, only by controlling them can I hope to survive. Capture her alive. Don't let her control the power of the ancient demonic beasts. Hurry. She's about to succeed. Once she masters that kind of power, we will definitely die. Disturbing my M.O. Sect Disciples Enlightenment, die. Not bad, Luo Bing. At the moment of life and death, you indeed didn't waste your enlightenment. Why did the human come here? To think that he's still alive, I don't know what kind of trick he used to stall the Black King. Whatever, a mere fifth rank great completion human cultivator is nothing impressive, let's kill him first. That's right, kill him, and then capture that woman. Kill. 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 In that case, should I try it? You've accumulated and absorbed 500% of spiritual energy and can activate divine ascension. Do you wish to use it? Yes. He's trying to use some technique. Take this opportunity to kill him. Brothers, attack. Kill. Kill. Divine ascension. So, this is what it feels like to ascend to godhood. It's so powerful, but it doesn't give me a nice feeling. It's more violent than slaughter, just now. It felt as if those lives in front of me were no longer important. I'd lost all emotions towards living beings. 
System, what kind of domain is Chuman Ascension? On the way to Lujo, I've searched through all the secret scrolls in the Heavenly Secrets Tower, but I didn't find any records that had any connection to this domain. Unable to read. Sure enough, the system knows, but I don't have the permission to read it. What exactly is the system? Actually, I have never thought of that. Why did the world of Tianxian appear on Earth and become a phenomenal game? And the avatars created by the players in this world, are they really humans or are they something else? But the more important thing right now is to level up my abilities. Once the Tianxian Calamity is overcome, I will know it sooner or later. She's still in enlightenment. Something seems to be happening in her sea of consciousness. She finally began converting the power of the altar orbs into her own energy. The power of the altar orbs is immense. Her body is unable to completely digest it and she needs my help. One more level and she will reach 4th rank great completion. It stopped. Less than one third of the power of the altar orbs was converted. Why did it stop? Young Lord? Young Lord. Young Lord, you're still alive. Of course I'm still alive. Did you really think that a mere 7th rank monster king could kill me? M. A mere 7th rank monster king. Among all the 5th rank cultivators now, Young Lord is probably the only one who could say this kind of words. That's right, Young Lord, while I was in a trance just now, I felt like I was absorbing some kind of power, and I saw a lot of strange things. Take a look at your realm. MHM. 4th rank 9th layer. Young Lord. I actually reached the 4th rank 9th layer. You reached an enlightened state, absorbing one-third of the altar orb power, and have stepped into the fourth rank ninth layer. But this venerable one is very curious. When you were being enlightened, what did you see? I saw. I saw. A small sapling, a small whale, and a small dragon beast. They all seemed to like me and were surrounding me, acting cute. H.M.? Acting cute? I thought she was communicating with the three ancient demonic beasts and guiding them to turn over a new leaf and become normal beasts again, but that didn't happen. Though it's probably not a big deal. As long as you're fine, if you don't feel well any time, remember to tell me immediately. We're heading to the next destination. Yes, thank you young lord, for your concern. Oh right, young lord. What about the Jade Falcon Clan and that 7th rank Monster King? At that time, the Monster King used a massive destructive technique. How did you? The 7th rank Monster King was killed by me, and the Jade Falcon's Queen has become your master's named Disciple. Not only did the young lord slay a 7th rank Monster King with just a 5th rank cultivation, he even helped Master recruit Disciples. Master my master who's always composed, I wonder if she will be happy. Th then young lord, where are we going next? The white deer forest. The white deer forest. Young lord. I is it the white deer foresty that the sword sovereign mentioned? If you have the chance, find some time to visit Lujo's white deer forest. Perhaps there will be something waiting for you there. That's right. Since the Sword Sovereign mentioned it personally, the secrets behind your origin are probably hidden there. Young Lord, actually, Luo Bing no longer cares about her origins. Mo Sect is Luo Bing's home, now and in the future. I didn't say that Mo Sect isn't your home, it's just. What if your true family is looking for you? In my previous life, I've read many news stories about people getting kidnapped and sold. Their family searched everywhere for them. Parents as flashy and flamboyant as mine in my previous life are actually quite rare. Most of them in the world love their child deeply. It's a shame that I'm just one who is chosen by the heavens. The white deer forest is still very far away. With the speed of this flying vessel, it will take three days to arrive. In that case, why don't I find something to do? For example, unlocking the sword embryo forging blueprint? 
After all, this venerable one has a lot of capital to squander. Black Storage Ring Space You've successfully redeemed Yellow Grade Sword Embryo Forging Blueprint. You've successfully redeemed Blue Grade Sword Embryo Forging Blueprint. It's a shame that the Purple Grade requires three Purple Grade Monster Heart and one Lorange Grade Monster Heart. The road to unlocking the Higher Grade Sword Embryo is long and full of trials. In that case, I shall unlock the Yellow Grade first and begin forging. In Luo Bing's perspective, sect leader Lu entered a trance. Once the young lord begins his meditation, it will last for quite a while. Despite being a renowned figure in the Tianqian world, young master is still so diligent in his cultivation. Perhaps if I work a little harder, I will be able to help the young lord. I wonder if those three little guys will appear again. Inner Realm Are you all here? All of you are here. When I'm with them, I feel strangely happy. What a weird feeling. It's just like playing with your own kids. But I don't have any children. I'm so ashamed. How can I have such weird thoughts? Could it be that my body wants to give birth to children for young lord? Hugh. It's neither easy nor difficult to forge this yellow great sword embryo. It's fortunate that this venerable one's mastery over spiritual energy is so precise. But I don't have many sword forging stones, so I can't forge more to gain experience. H.M. Luo Bing has stepped into the peak of the fourth rank. How did she do it? Fourth rank great completion. Her speed of breaking through is similar to Hei Ting. But Luo Bing is an ordinary cultivator. When she breaks through to the fifth rank, she will be able to awaken a domain. One altar is enough to give such a huge boost to Luo Bing. If I sweep clean all the Purple Moon Cult altars in Qingzhou, wouldn't that be amazing? The Purple Moon Cult is essentially an experience-boosting dungeon, and with all the various good stuff it gives, it can truly be called the most rewarding dungeon. Once I'm back in Qingzhou, I will start farming. Heh heh heh. Promotion mission breakthrough the fifth rank has been completed with a rating of S. It's finally here. This time, the rating is correct. Rewards received, experience, X1, 500, 000, 000, 000, spear aptitude orb, X1, yellow grade sword forging stones, times 99. The rewards are a little ridiculous. The yellow grade sword forging stones are perfect materials for forging sword embryos. The experience points are better than nothing. These rewards are reasonable. But, but this, Spear Aptitude Orby, is a little ridiculous. The aptitude and talents of NPC in this game Tianqian world are fixed, but this orb can actually help others increase their aptitude. Spear Aptitude Orb, Description, can help the user receive one Spear Aptitude Point. Not bad, not bad, this time, the system is pretty great. This orb is perfect as a gift for Sinyan. I suddenly miss Sinyan a little. Once Luo Bing's matter is settled, I will head back immediately. Speaking of going back, I wonder how MO Sect is doing. Master, I've already practiced this five times today. MHM, alright, practice five more times. Did Master even hear my words? Brother took Luo Bing with her while Hei Ting and Yang Shu left. I wonder when they will be back. Forget it, I'm going back to studying formation techniques. After all, HM, there are guests. Mountain of Mountains Mubailu and Buddhist sects Nan Wu request for an audience with MO sex sect leader. The sect leader isn't here, why are you two looking for him? These are the treasures from our masters for losing their bet with sect leader Lu. Please accept this. A. Eh? Treasures from Buddhist sect and Mountain of Mountains? Brother won them from their masters? Since we've already delivered the goods, we won't stay any longer. Farewell. Looking at their actions, it seems like many things have happened. 
but since they are items that brother won, I'll let him open them himself when he comes back. I wonder, where are brother and Luo being now? Hugh. To think that it would be so tiring playing with the three of them for a while. But I seem to have broken through and am now at the fourth rank great completion. H.M.? H.M., I clearly felt that I absorbed a large amount of spiritual energy from those three little guys, but why did I only level up one layer? Your realm seems to be locked by something. Young Lord, do you know anything about it? You received a large amount of spiritual energy from the altar orbs just now, but your realm is still stuck at fourth rank great completion and is unable to advance any further. The excess spiritual energy is forcefully stored in your spiritual sea. If you continue, there might be danger, that's why I awakened you. So that's the case. No wonder I feel so exhausted. Be you but why is my realm at a bottleneck? I'm afraid it has something to do with your divine soul. I can't clearly see your divine soul even after using my abilities. Perhaps we will get an answer when we reach the White Deer Forest. In half a day, we'll arrive at the White Deer Forest. White Deer Forest. If my family is really there, how am I going to interact with them? In the past. Why did they abandon me? If it wasn't for Young Lord, I would probably still be in that building. White Deer Forest, if I really found Luo Bing's parents, and they are unable to give a logical explanation as to why they abandoned Luo Bing. Then this venerable ones, never night, will chop off their heads. No one bullies my M.O. sex disciples. This is the White Deer Forest? The location coordinates are absolutely accurate. This is the White Deer Forest, but why are the trees like this? One side is black and the other side is white. There must be something abnormal happening here. Let's go and investigate first. Yes. There are two different yet connected spiritual powers here. It is this spiritual power that affects the pattern of the woods. Different yet connected spiritual powers? They are both the spiritual energy of the monster race, but they are repelling and attracting each other. What kind of monster can create such a massive effect? Could it be that my parents are actually... Humans. Leave my clan's territory immediately. Pindu General. Yang Deer Clan, LV67. Description, the Yang Deer Clan's purest red fur kind, possessing immense strength. The strongest and most loyal warrior within the Yang Deer Clan. Level 67, that's weaker than the Eagle King, which means that there is more to this deer, otherwise, how can he be the strongest Yang Deer warrior? Humans, leave my clan's territory immediately. Another voice? And it's a nice sounding female voice at that. Ean Deer Clan LV67 Description The Ean Deer Clan's purest blue fur kind, possessing immense strength. The strongest and most loyal warrior within the Ean Deer Clan. Ean Deer Clan? What kind of symmetry is this? Leave our territory. Leave. Leave. Go to their side. Go to their side. Leave. Leave. What the hell? I have to find a way to shut them both up first. Young master, I'm feeling so dizzy. Luo Bing, what's wrong? Did she absorb too much power from the altar orbs and her body couldn't handle it any longer? No, there's something wrong with this place. This place is devouring Luo Bing's divine soul. Hold on. Guard your divine soul. Young master, why did I faint just now? My head hurts. You're fine now, it's just that. Someone set up a formation in that black and white forest. It's a formation that only targets you. Once you step into that area, it will devour your divine soul. W.H. Watts going on? I don't know at the moment. But perhaps we came to the right place. This place definitely has a strong connection to you. 
the Inyam Deer clans probably know something. My young friend Chao Ji, you're mistaken, they truly know nothing at all. Who's talking? Junior Lu Chao Ge greets Senior. I had sensed him long ago, this Senior has been watching us for quite some time, but the system didn't alert me of any danger. It's highly likely that he's here to help. You're too polite, you're too polite. The Inyam Deer Clan isn't that knowledgeable, but I do know a thing or two about this child's origins. It's just that finding her origins won't be easy. Ex excuse me, senior, may I ask? How difficult would finding my origins be? If you aren't careful, there is a danger of losing your life. To think that there is such a danger. Young lord, why don't we forget it? If you fall into any danger while searching for my origins, I won't be able to atone for my sin, even with myriad deaths. We're already here. If we turn back now, won't you regret it? Luo Bing will never regret it. Compared to the young lord's safety, finding my parents means nothing. Her gaze is so determined, her thoughts must be all about my safety, to think that an irrefutable reason like we're already here is still unable to shake her resolve. As expected, it is as I thought, she is this kind of lady. Luo Bing, apart from personal matters, this venerable one came to Luzhou to resolve the worries in your heart. Your master once told me that ever since Lord Sword Sovereign mentioned Luzhou in front of you, you would occasionally gaze towards its direction late at night and murmur its name. Master actually saw it. Your master entrusted me to resolve your inner conflict no matter what. Your master said, The Tianqian calamity is approaching if we can't overcome this calamity. At the very least, we must make sure that our disciples have no lasting regrets. Master, the reason Dong Li said those words is actually not just because of the imminent Tianqian calamity. I hope they won't be like the two of us, if only we were a little stronger back when father and mother were around. That would be great. Because she had been drenched by the rain herself, she always thinks about holding an umbrella out for others. We're prepared, senior. Please give us your guidance. Are you two really not afraid of death? Don't worry, senior. So many people have tried to kill me over the years, but not a single one of them succeeded. Even if there really is a super monster king, I still have the resurrection coin. I can take Luo Bing and run with no problems. The river may flow east for 30 years, or it will flow west for 30 years. I'll level up, break through, and come back to take him down. Hey, <laughs> hey. You are indeed as interesting as the sword sovereign said. It looks like this old man is the old friend that Lord Sword Sovereign mentioned. No wonder I can't analyze him. I've broken through to the sixth rank, in other words, I'm level 61. In that case, he should be at least level 82. Let this old man tell you, this place was once inscribed with a ceiling formation by a powerful monster clan figure to suppress a great monster and the nine-colored deer king of the Inyang deer clan, entrusted by this powerful figure, led his clan to guard this place. The great monster that was suppressed by the ceiling formation is closely related to your birth. If you want to discover your origins, you must first unravel the ceiling formation. That seems easy. I know a thing or two regarding breaking formations. How can it be easy? This ceiling formation was set up by a powerful figure from the monster clan and can only be undone by the secret techniques of the Inyang Deer Clan. To break this formation, one must rely on the power of the Inyang Deer Clan. But from what I see, the two clans of In and Yang seem to be at odds with each other like fire and water. It may not be easy to draw the strength of the two clans. Besides, did the nine-colored deer king allow them to be so divided? The nine-colored deer king fell three years ago. That year, he and I, together with a group of experts from the Mountain of Mountains, faced an eighth-ranked demonic beast that escaped from the Eye of Chaos. Brother Nine-Colored Deer sacrificed himself to slay the demonic beast in a great act of righteousness. To think that an eighth-ranked demonic beast would require so many experts from Luzhou to face it together, and that a monster king had to die for the demonic beast to be killed. Whereas a ninth rank dragon beast was killed by Senior Luo alone, Senior Luo is indeed worthy of being one of the four divine swordsmen. 
Since then, the people of the Nine Colored Deer Clan have been trying to choose a new leader. However, the Ying Deer Clan and the Yang Deer Clan refuse to yield to each other. Years of this struggle have led to the current state of the Inyam Forest. The Yin Deer Clan and Yang Deer Clan are now at odds like water and fire, but there is still a great danger here, ready to devour both clans at any moment. With your intelligence, you must have already understood why this old man is helping you. Senior is highly righteous and wants to save the clan of his good friend from being destroyed. Senior also wanted to see whether I can bear the future of Tianqian. Excellent, excellent, excellent. You saw right through my thoughts. Your reputation is too great. Even the sword sovereign of Qingzhou holds you in such high regard. I can't help but want to test you. It seems like this great danger would be the key to solving this situation. That's right. In three days, the Inyam Deer clans will hold a leadership election once again. There will definitely be a great battle. The demonic cultivators hiding in the shadows will surely take the opportunity to strike. That will be the best time for us to mend the relationship between the two clans. But if the two clans are unable to elect a new leader, won't we waste our efforts? I have observed this land for more than a year, as for the new leader. I actually have a pick in mind. At that time, sect leader Lu, you can join me in seeing whether she is truly fit to become the new leader of the deer clan. Three days later, Inyam Deer Clan Gathering Place. The time of the year has come again. It's about time we decide a new leader of the Inyam Deer Clans, don't you think? If we delay this any longer, the land will be destroyed by our clan's spiritual energy. That would be too late. I have the same intention. It's about time for the conflict between brother and my clan to reach a conclusion. If brother really wants to become the leader of the two clans, today this sister will let you. Shut up. The Yang Deer Clan and the Yin Deer Clan should determine the leader with dignity and fairness, and not through concessions. Today, I will decisively determine the victor with your Yin Deer Clan. Is there something wrong with the leader of the Yang Deer Clan? She has already agreed to let him be the leader. The intelligence of the monster clan is not on par with the humans. Sometimes, they are indeed quite narrow-minded. There's an aura of a demonic cultivator from the spiritual energy transmitted back by the power of water. It seems to be at the peak of sixth rank. That guy has arrived. Everyone from the Inyam Deer clan is here. My babies, you must be anxious waiting so long, right? The fresh sacrificial blood of high-tier monster clans like the Inyang Deer Clan will surely help us to reach the seventh rank. Hey, hey, hey. Yang Deer King, don't think that we're afraid of you. If you want to fight, then let's fight. Alon, don't be like this. Our two clans will suffer greatly. It's they who wanted to fight. Are we supposed to be scared of them? This is what I want. A proper battle. Yang Deer Warriors, prepare for battle. Warriors of the Yin Deer Clan. Show them what we've got. Everyone, don't be rash. Come and settle the victor once and for all. Yin Yu. Brother Yang Ri, I don't want to fight you. A battle would only harm both of our clans. Senior, is the person you chose right here? That Yang Deer King is too stupid, while the Yin Deer Queen is too soft. Both of them aren't suitable. Don't be anxious, she will appear. If anyone here dares to make a move, I will take Brother Yang Yu and die together with him. Yuner, what are you doing? What are you doing? Let go of my son. The Inyang Deer clans share the same ancestor and origins. Our abilities are on par with each other. If the two clans fight, everyone will perish together. Since all of you are going to die anyway, how will he and I survive? We might as well die early. You. Yuner. Over the years, I have read many human books which mention that many human sects also fell apart due to lack of leadership, eventually being picked off one by one by demonic cultivators until they were annihilated. I do not wish for our Inyam Deer clans to disappear, so Iko could only resort to such tricks. 
I've heard of such stories when I was young too. I never wanted disputes, but most of my clan members do not like the Yom Deer clan. The Inyam Deers were originally one clan, together they thrive, divided they perish. Why do you elders not understand such a simple principle? If the two of you aren't fit to be the leader, then I will be one. Senior, could it be that child you chose? That's right. She remained calm and decisive, immediately kidnapping the enemy's young master and stepping into the battle herself. Even though her body trembled with fear, she risked her life to stop the war between the two clans. Even at such a young age, she possesses such strong character. When she grows up, she will definitely become a new pillar of support for the monster clan. She's indeed better than the other deers, but she also benefits from the monster clan's generally lower intelligence and excessive emotional attachment. After all, in the human history I've read in my previous life, there were quite a few schemers who sacrificed children to achieve their own end. Mother, Uncle Yang Ri. Tell me, yes or no? All right, all right. Quickly let go of Yang Yu's hand. Yuner, don't do something foolish. B, but doing this is not dignified at all. The prince is in her hands. Since everyone agreed, then make an oath incantation now. An earthquake? I, it's not an earthquake. There's a surge of spiritual energy beneath the ground. It's the spiritual energy of demonic cultivators and demonic beasts. Where's my Yuner? Yuner? Where's my son? Tee they are over there. Little things, the purest Ean and Yang Deer's blood in your veins smells so nice. Demonic cultivator. I'm not afraid of you. I am the new queen of the Ean Yang Deer clan. Leave now and I will spare your life. Sister, I'm scared. Spare my life? Ha ha ha. You are so interesting. Little thing. Come play with me. A home, I will leave the Deer clan to you. I'm definitely not his opponent, but I only need to delay him for some time. The adults will definitely come and rescue us. We Inyam Deer Clan are not weak. How can a mere second rank monster hurt me? Brother Yang Yu, you run first. Sister. Sister. You're about to die and yet you're still trying to save others. How foolish. If you kill me, the Inyam Deer Clans will never let you off. Ha 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 ha. Look at the trash around you. You're in Yang Deer Clan? I am a sixth rank peak great demonic cultivator. How could this be? My clan shouldn't be this weak. Damn it. I can't believe I'm losing to a stupid and dumb beast like you in a proper battle. Grot. Uncle Yang Ri. Why is someone as powerful as Uncle Yang Ri unable to defeat a demonic cultivator of the same rank? Something isn't right. This demonic cultivator must have used some dirty tricks. Mother, don't come and save me. It's a trap. Let go of my Yuner. Oh no. Look at that. Despite knowing it was a trap, she still fell for it. Mother. In order to devour your Inyam Deer Clan's living souls, I have planned for a whole year. I didn't expect a little deer to be the first to realize this is a trap. That demonic cultivator is destroying the Inyam Deer Clan. Senior, are you not going to take action? The Inyam Deer Clan has been fighting among themselves for three years. Let them suffer a bit and learn their lesson. Besides, look closely, that demonic cultivator has yet to kill a single deer because he is planning something even more cruel. Could it be? The live sacrifice evil technique that only demonic cultivators cultivate? That's right. He wants to sacrifice the entire Inyam Deer Clan and devour their living spirit and blood energy to break through. I can't just do nothing. What's going on? Why can't I use any spiritual energy? My arm is so heavy. Don't waste your effort. I admit, your Inyam Deer Clan is an upper-tier monster clan, and your race talent is very powerful. 
That's why I've spent a year meticulously preparing many good things for you all. It's poison. No wonder it felt so tough to deal with that dumb scorpion. Damn it. He must have known that our clans would gather and used such a dirty trick. Now, I shall enjoy your clan's blood energy and living soul. Ha ha ha, it's mine, it's all mine. I've waited so painfully for a whole year. I really thank everyone for your selfless donation. Damn it. If only I were a little stronger, or a little older. How could I get captured by someone like this? Damn it. Little girl, do you need help? W-H, who are you? You don't need to know who I am. You just have to shout and ask for a human senior to save you, and someone will naturally come. Who human? C.A., can you save me? Save everyone? As expected of the person I picked. This old man can't guarantee it, but you can give it a try first. Be you but. Little thing, what are you murmuring about? I am feeling kind, so I will drain you of your monster blood first. I don't care whether I believe it or not, this is my only chance left. Human senior, please save us. Human senior, please save us. Human senior, please save us. At this time, where would any human senior pass by? Young miss, she's still shouting for our sake. It's the voice of the young miss of the Ian Deer clan, but... It's all too late. Ha 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 ha. The Inyang Deer clan and humans have a close relationship. You guys even helped them kill demonic beasts and cultivators. This is also a reason why I chose you guys. Now that all of you are about to die, why would the humans care about you? Ha 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 ha. I care. You are not comparable to the Inyang Deer clan, whose previous king sacrificed himself for the greater good without endangering lives. You, you, you are. Ah. It's water. Water caught me? Evil artifacts shouldn't remain either. My blood energy and divine soul are coming back. A human senior actually came to save us. Human senior, be careful. Thank you. This senior... H. How is he so good looking? Just like the immortals recorded in books. You've slain demonic cultivator, do you? LV70, 6th rank great completion. You've received 5 million EXP. You've slain the demonic beast red crystal 5 tailed scorpion. LV67, you've received 3 million EXP. You've slain the demonic beast blue crystal three-tailed scorpion, LV-66. You've received two million EXP. You've slain the demonic beast blue crystal three-tailed scorpion, LV-65. You've received 1.8 million EXP. I fought with opponents at a higher rank so often that I could kill a sixth rank trash like him in one slash. It's a shame that the rewards are ordinary. Forget it, it's no loss to do it as a side task. You've slain someone from Demonic Spirit Cult Demon Arm. You've received 20,000 reputation points. You've received a special reward, Sword Technique Drawing Voucher X1. HM? Wait. I see. So Luzhou has a demonic cultivation organization like Qingzhou and Beizhou, and this guy has the position of Demon Arm. Looking at the rewards, it seems like his position in the organization is equal to an elder. I have earned big this time. Thank you, Human Senior, for saving our clan. Please accept my gratitude. Thank you, Human Senior, for saving our clan. We will never forget your great kindness. Everyone, please rise. The reason why this Venerable One helped you today is not purely out of selflessness. Human Senior, what do you want from us? If our clan can help, we will definitely give it our all. This little girl always acts as if she's in charge. It's quite amusing for someone so young. In that case, I will speak plainly. The reason I intervened is primarily due to the noble sacrifice of the previous nine-colored deer king who gave his life to slay the demonic beast and save Luzhou. Secondly, 
I hope everyone can help me break the ceiling formation in this land. Senior, you mustn't. This ceiling formation is suppressing a calamitous great monster. If it's released, all life will be in peril. Senior, if that calamitous great monster appears, our Inyang Deer Clan will be gravely at fault. Calamitous great monster? All four great deer monsters here are at the sixth rank, so to be called a calamitous monster by them what kind of existence could it be? Sect Leader Lu, that demon was one that the now deceased nine colored deer king and the celestial patterned heavenly fox clan jointly suppressed. We don't actually know its full details. You recognize me? Who in Tianxian doesn't know the famous sect leader Lu? A man of striking appearance, with unmatched talent. How could anyone not know such an extraordinary man? There are countless people in Tianxian secretly admiring sect leader Lu, yet few have the chance to meet him. There's even a rumor going around, one glimpse at Chao Ge will ensnare your heart. Now that I've seen him in person, I truly believe it. If only I were a few hundred years younger. Since you know me, please open this formation. If there really is a calamitous great monster, this venerable will take care of it for you. Senior Lu has just saved our entire clan. If we refuse him now, wouldn't that be ungrateful of us? Besides, I trust Senior Lu must have his reasons. Even if that great monster is released, with him and so many of our clan members here, what is there to fear? Furthermore, the formation that seals the monster drains our Inyang Deer clan spiritual energy every year, which is why we don't even have a single seventh stage great monster in our clan today. If we break this formation and slay that monster, it would be greatly beneficial to our clan. Yuner's words make sense. If we can truly subdue that great monster, our Yin Yang Deer Clan could cultivate diligently in the future. Then we ask Sect Leader Lu to subdue the monster. All right. Break the formation. Yes. This formation is intricate. If I were to judge its level, it would be at least of the purple grade. However, that elder really isn't intervening at all. Sect Leader Lu, I'll be watching you closely from above. If it weren't for breaking Luo Bing's mental barrier, I wouldn't bother interacting with you. But is this sealed great monster really related to Luo Bing? Young Lord, why are you here? That elder said a monster clan closely related to my background is about to emerge and told me to come closer and watch. H.M.? Why get closer? Can't you see from up there? Something feels off. Unseal open the formation. Step back, everyone. From here on, leave it to me. Yes. Such a powerful aura. Young Lord, what's down there? I feel like I can't breathe. This strand of spiritual energy will help you dispel the pressure of the monster's aura. Once it appears, take a glance and then immediately retreat. Since the Elder wants you to see it, there must be a reason. I had been regretting being spawned into the monster clan for a long time. Luringia LV-22 but who would have thought I'd have the chance to see Lu Chauga in person? My luck is finally here. Camera tracking complete. Live stream interface open. Hello friends, it's the latest live stream for the only true god in Tianqian, Lu Chauga. If you want to watch, follow me, Lu Rinjia. Where is Lu Chauga right now? Why are there beast girls everywhere? That little girl with deer antlers is so cute. Is there really a place like this in Tianqian world? What's happening? Is this some kind of divine event? An earthquake? Lu Chaoga, as expected of the protagonist. Wherever he goes, something dramatic happens. Is there something underground? Hurry, hurry. Why isn't anyone explaining? Is the streamer mute? Calm down, calm down. A great monster is about to emerge. I can't speak too loudly. Thanks for understanding, dear friends. Look. It's coming. 
the entrance sure is grand. Phew, I can finally see the daylight again. Who broke the seal? Was it Brother Nine Colored Deer King? Looks like you finally figured it out as long as you cooperate with me. There's nothing difficult about unifying the monster realm. She's so beautiful. I'd follow her anywhere. If I could kiss her once, I'd die happy. The former Deer King has already passed away. The one who released you is sect leader Lu of the M.O. sect, so stop trying to delude my clan. Oh, adorable little sister, can you tell big sister who's this sect leader Luan? I. I'm not falling for your tricks. You can ask me beast girl. Ask me. I'd even tell you my bank card pin number. How could such a perfect girl exist? I'm so in love. Suddenly, I kind of understand why King Zhou fell. A bunch of low-level little monsters, not even at the seventh rank. Since the nine-colored deer king is already dead, I'll let these little ones go join him. Sink into my arms and sleep peacefully in bliss. Who? I am the sect leader Lu you are looking for, and these deer clan members are under this venerable's protection. This handsome brother, would you like to have some fun with this little sister? Engaging in the most tender and soft pleasures. Wouldn't that be more enjoyable than all this fighting and killing? Old lady, if I'm not mistaken, you are at least a few hundred years old, right? At such an age, calling yourself little sister. Isn't that a bit shameless? You. H.M.? Why does she smell like her? She's been dead for decades. Is that... Is that her? She finally noticed Luo Bing. Judging by her expression, it's definitely related to Luo Bing. Let's see what's the truth behind this. I don't believe it. I don't believe she's still alive. I need to see it clearly. She's coming towards me. No need to be so nervous. I'll be right behind you. Yes, young lord. Is it really you? Did she mistake me for someone else? All these years. You have been doing well? I haven't been well at all. I've been trapped in this formation, having my soul devoured daily. My cultivation kept decreasing day by day. Each day felt like being torn apart, as if a thou sand arrows pierced my body trapped between life and death. But, despite all that pain, I never once forgot about you. Because, no pain can compare to what I felt when I thrust my hand into your heart. No, no, that's not right. I killed you with my own hands. You should be dead. Who are you? Who exactly are you? I am Luo Bing, a disciple of M.O. Sect. I've never met you. I don't know you. You've mistaken me for someone else. Luo Bing. That name. So familiar. Luo Bing. Luo Bing. Luo Bing. She's her child. Didn't I leave you at a farmer's doorstep? How did you end up as a cultivator? You were supposed to live your life in the mud, aimlessly. It was. It was you. Who abandoned me with my adoptive parents. You've been with me for years. And yet you still haven't born a single child. Now we've got a girl, and she's useless. If you can't bear a son, I'll beat you to death one day. What's the point of keeping such a burden? Are we waiting to raise her, only to have to pay for her dowry? The money we got from pawning that Jade pendant is long gone in gambling. I won't be paying for her dowry. I can't bear sons because of you. If you're so tough, come at me. Don't take it out on the child. Fine, I'll come at you. Do you think I don't dare? Ah. 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 You're going to kill me. Ah. Back then, I was too young to understand. I thought they hated me because I was a girl. I thought. They were my real parents. 
Big sister, look, this girl's body is in great shape. When she grows up, she'll definitely popular among men. We agreed on two silver tails, don't shortchange me. Don't worry, sister. I'm a businesswoman of integrity. This girl is indeed a good stock. After raising her for four or five years, I'll make back both principal and profit. Mother. Mother, mother, please don't leave me. Mother. I can eat less. Please don't abandon me. Mother. Fortunately, I later met young lord and master. But even after joining the M.O. sect, I can't forgive my parents. It wasn't until Lord Sword Sovereign appeared that day. I began to suspect that my real parents might be someone else. Why did you abandon me? Where are my parents? They're dead. I killed them with my own hands. Your mother betrayed me. I loved her so much. But she insisted on leaving me to be with a human male. She even had you with that human. So, after she gave birth and was weakened, I killed that human. And I killed her too. I crushed her heart with my own hands. But, but, as she was dying. Yinner, sister has a favor to ask of you. My child, her name is Luo Bing. She's innocent. I entrust her to you. At least let her live, okay? Her last words were to beg me to let you live. I hated so much. Even as she died, she never begged for forgiveness. Everyone, protect your hearts. Beware of her monster aura. Even though she's fallen from the 8th stage to the 7th, she's still powerful. So, it was all because of you. Because of you. I will avenge my father and mother. You can't kill her. Stand down. You followed me for so many years, you should know. I, Lu Chowga, protect my people the most. Yes, young lord. Watch this. Such a powerful sword move, M.O. Sex Sect Leader Lu must be really angry. Sect Leader Lu really is protective of his people. This demoness is such a waste of a good appearance. It's one thing to be in love with her own sister, but she even killed her with her own hands, how twisted. The key point is that the one she killed were Luo Bing's parents. And Luo Bing is the pure goddess of the M.O. sect. Lu Chaoga going all out at the start, he must be fuming inside. Do you think I would be afraid of you, a mere human cultivator at the beginning stage of the 6th rank? I was once an 8th rank monster saint. Ah, uh, help. Why? Hold on to the tree tight. I'm actually being flown away. The first generation sword sovereigns move slowed sound, its final form that only the sword sovereigns of past generations have been able to comprehend, he can actually use it. Not bad, not bad. Domain unveil. Slaughter. First I'll kill you. Then I'll go kill that Juyin's daughter. She's at the seventh rank, sixth heavenly layer. She's stronger than Black King. Plus, the bloodline of the celestial patterned fox clan is obviously a few tiers above the Black Feather Eagle. Just relying on slaughter won't be enough to kill her. I can't hold back. Immortal Ascension. Activate. He 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 he. Such a strong human, it seems that the soul gnawing seal has indeed taken quite a bit of power from me. But even if I've fallen to the seventh rank, I'm still not someone a mere human like you can kill. Her aura is changing. Could it be the innate divine power of her clan? There's no need to give her the chance to transform. Ink Dragon Slaughter Immortal Ascension. With this slash, I'll take your life. Once the absorbed spiritual energy reaches 200% of personal spiritual energy, this effect is activated. All attributes increase by 50%. Slaughter. Life Sword. Each strike increases damage by 1%. Stackable up to 50 times. Death Sword. 
Each kill increases killing intent by 1%, which can be converted into critical damage. Stackable up to 50 times. F Water Affinity. When the sword is imbued with water, damage is increased by 15%. Sword weight decreases by 15%. J F Monster Slayer. Increased damage dealt to monsters and demonic beasts by 10%. J. F. Slowed Sound Serious Strike, a slow slash dealing 200% damage. How can this be? How could a mere human sever my true body? There was once a monster that survived even after I severed its body, but I won't let that happen again. Juyin. 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 Even if I face eternal damnation, even if I can never reincarnate, I will turn your bastard's whole body into ashes. Juyin's child, Dai. Sacrificing the Dao body to become a divine soul, what kind of forbidden technique is this? Soul sever. But don't think you'll get away with it. In front of the sword heart, your divine soul will undoubtedly perish. Juyin. Juyin. You're still like this making me want more. In. Actually, I have something to tell you. From now on, let's just be normal sisters, okay? What's the matter? I've fallen in love with someone. It's different from the kind of like we share, I think. I understand what love is. You say you understand, then tell me. What is love? Love is when you'd willingly destroy your soul for that person, without any regrets. Juyin. I think I understand it a little. Hate. Can be the same. Luo Bing's thoughts are clouded right now. Even though vengeance for her parents has been fulfilled, everything that was lost can never be restored. Such is life, filled with ups and downs, rarely going as one wishes, leaving people with sorrow. I have deeply experienced this, both in my previous life and the present one. We thank sect leader Lu for slaying the monster on behalf of our clan. You have freed our clan from decades of suffering. Everyone, there is no need for such formalities. As I said before, I had my own reasons. Even so, sect leader Lu has truly saved us twice. First, you prevented our clan from being annihilated, and second, you shattered the cultivation shackles that had bound us for decades. Such great kindness is something our Inyang Deer clan can never repay. Therefore, we have discussed it, and from now on, if Sect Leader Lu ever summons us, the Inyang Deer clan will assist you with all our might, even if it means risking our lives. If Sect Leader Lu calls for aid, the Inyang Deer clan will not hesitate to risk our lives. In that case, I will accept this favor for now. The Inyam Deer Clan holds a high status among the monster clans. In the coming catastrophe, they will be a great help. Sect Leader Lu. Look over here. I found a jade pendant. It seems like it belonged to that monster fox from earlier. Warehouse a name and level on his head. That person is actually a player. Everyone, look. Lu Chaoga is looking at me. He's actually looking directly at me. Not bad. Whoa. Such divine handsomeness. Mind-blowing. So this is what it feels like to be looked at by Lu Chaoga. This guy's luck is unbelievable. This streamer is unbeatable. If it were me, I'd be bragging for a year. Too magnificent. Wow. Sect leader Lu praised me. Even though sect leader Lu praised him, there is no need for such a big reaction. This person's luck is insane. I'm so envious, I wish Senior Lu would praise me too. Ching Yin's body and soul are completely destroyed. This is likely the only trace she left behind, and perhaps it contains her years of savings. Let's see if there's anything Luo Bing can use. Consider it her compensation for Luo Bing. HM? This is an item of the Celestial Patent Fox Clan. It cannot be given to others. Undetectable. These two are at least beyond the Eighth Realm. Senior, I presume you're here for more than just this mere jade pendant? Daoist friend Lu, no need to worry. 
I am the current leader of the Celestial Patterned Fox Clan. My name is Qingqiu Zhaixing. Current leader of the Celestial Patterned Fox Clan Qingqiu Zhaoling. Qingqiu Chen. This is my personal guard, Qingqiu Chen. That's the current leader of the Celestial Patterned Fox Clan. Such powerful monster energy. No wonder even the nine-colored deer king treats him with respect. It's said that his strength rivals that of the strongest of our monster race, the three saints. Such immense monster energy. Qin Yin was my younger sister. Now that she has perished, I must retrieve her belongings. Additionally, I have another purpose. I wish to see the true bloodline of my sister Zhu Yin. So Luo Bing's mother and that fox monster Qin Yin from earlier were both part of the celestial patterned fox clan. No wonder Qin Yin was still so powerful after being suppressed for so many years. Such a remarkable movement technique. She does indeed resemble Elder Sister. If he intends to harm Luo Bing, even if he's in the 8th rank, I will act first. No need to be tense. The clan leader only wants to comfort her. You're a good child. My sister knows it. Don't be sad for her. My older sister was much stronger than Qin Yin. She willingly died at her hands. Little one, you must understand, the more one is born superior, the more one is burdened by their heart. Your mother was such a person. But your heart surpasses even mine. Extend your hand. I have something to return to you. I'm curious, why didn't you two appear earlier, but only after Qin Yan's death? First, Qin Yan was the clan leader's sister. Are you suggesting we should have helped you kill her? Second, the clan leader wanted to see if you were worthy of being the master of a member of the Celestial Patterned Fox Clan. And so? You are indeed worthy. But Luo Bing is different from us. She possesses the nine-turn Linglong heart, with the potential to break to the ninth rank, and... Let's go. Yes. They came and went so suddenly. He truly has no ill intentions, but what is his true purpose? It's definitely not just to comfort Luo Bing. It must have something to do with the nine-turn Linglong heart. Lu Chaoga, you're impressive. Luo Bing's uncle, you two are impressive. Though their motives are unclear, I've learned two things. Luo Bing still has living relatives, she's not truly alone. Luo Bing possesses the nine turn Linglong heart, could she have the opportunity to break through to the ninth rank in the future? What's wrong? Why do you look so pale? He's coughing blood. The scorpion poison is acting up again. It hurts so much. It feels like my chest is being torn apart. Earlier, the entire deer clan was poisoned by the scorpion. After Qin Yin interrupted, the whole clan is now deeply poisoned. The lives of the entire Yinyang deer clan are in grave danger. Senior, will you not show yourself? Heh <laughs> heh. Little friend Lu, I didn't expect you to use such a method to force me out. Interesting, very interesting. Everyone, look above. It's... It's Lord St. Lou. It's really Lord St. Lou himself. That... That really is Lord St. Lou. He's one of the legendary three saints of the monster race. A true holy monster standing at the pinnacle of the monster race. Couldn't you handle these troubles yourself? Why force this old man to show up? I sincerely apologize. I'm not good at healing. Also, it might not be possible to support a new leader without a backing of a senior elder. Kid, not many people can outweed you. But you do make some valid points. I won't argue with you. Inyang Deer Clan, relax your dantian, sit and meditate. I will dispel the poison for you all. Yes, Lord Lu Sheng. Many thanks to Lord St. Lu. Thank you, Lord St. Lu, for helping. Thank you, Lord St. Lu, for saving us. Everyone, do you still remember why we gathered here today? Of course we remember, 
Brother Yang Ri and I is here to decide the new leader of the Inyang Deer Clan. Of course, but the decision on who will be the new leader hasn't been made yet. What? Are you all going to take back your words? Yuner, you don't understand the hardships of being a leader. It's not that easy. Mother doesn't want you to enter into these deep waters. What we said earlier was just idle talk. It shouldn't be taken seriously. You all. Yuner, come here. I think Yuner is perfect to be your new leader. Let the Ying Deer Queen and Yang Deer King assist Ying Ying until she is of age, after which she will handle clan matters. Before Yuna grows into a ruler, if the Inyang Deer Clan faces danger of extinction, I, St. Lu, will protect you. Everyone, what do you think? Everything is up to Lord St. Lu. From this moment on, with St. Lu overseeing the Inyang Deer Clan, their status in the monster world will once again rise to prominence. It's like having a founding elder visit and protect our MO sect. Now that the matter of Luo Bing's origins is resolved, it's time to take her back to the M.O. sect. She needs a moment of personal enlightenment in her current state. After Lu Chaoga and Lu Xing took care of the remaining issues and restored the Inyang forest, they bid farewell and left. Now, they are on their way back to the M.O. sect. It's been two days. She's been like this for two whole days. I still don't know what Qingqiu Jiaxing gave her. Luo Bing, may I take a look at what's in your hand? This can't go on. If Dong Li finds out that her disciple ended up like this because of me, she'll definitely come after me. This is. So. It's your mother's keepsake. Keepsake? Yes, it should be the identification jade of the celestial patterned fox clan. Ching Yin had one, so naturally your mother did as well, but your piece was probably sold by your adoptive parents. She hasn't even seen it till now? This girl really is oblivious to everything. Ju. Yin. Mother. Mother. Wait, this monster aura. Could it be? This object can only be awakened by the tears of my daughter, Luo Bing. Are you my daughter, Luo Bing? Mother, I. I am Luo Bing. You've grown so beautiful, even more beautiful than I was. Mother. The aura is unstable. This Zhu Yin is merely a manifestation of spiritual power. It will disappear before long. It can only be awakened by her daughter's tears, meaning it was all planned. She truly did willingly die by Qin Yan's hand, perhaps because she believed she had betrayed Qin Yan. Little one, seeing that you've grown up makes me very happy. Don't cry anymore. I think you already know everything, but there's no need to cry. In my life, I owe many people, but I owe you the most. I couldn't raise you, I couldn't watch you grow up, I couldn't see you getting married. But being able to see you this one time, I can die without regrets. Mother, I have so many things I want to say to you. There's no need to say anything, your mother knows. If you have anything to say, save it for your future loved ones. Life is a journey, and we must keep moving forward. That's the only lesson your mother can teach you. Mother, don't go. Mother. Mother. Your mother is right. In life, you must keep moving forward. Luo Bing breaks through the fourth rank great completion and enters the fifth rank. Cultivation is about cultivating the heart. When the heart achieves understanding and one's thoughts are clear, it is possible to break through the obstacles in one's mind and reach a level never before attained. Three days later, on the flying boat. Young Lord, we've reached the Qinglong River region. In less than half a day, we'll be home. You cried for a whole day and night. Why are you wrapping yourself up so tightly now? Luo Bing has changed a bit. I really don't want the young lord to see. After breaking through to the fifth rank, I awakened my domain, but this domain is making me feel a bit strange. 
So you've stepped into the realm of a fifth-rank cultivator. You should have awakened a domain, right? What kind of domain do you have? Of course I awakened it, but it's inconvenient to show it now. I'll demonstrate it for you and Master once we return to the M.O. sect. What is this girl hiding? Heavenly Dad warning, triggered by 1% of the Heavenly Dad's power, you can use the Heavenly Dao Pearl to see more details. Heavenly Dao warning. What is it trying to warn me about? An illusion? Xian Yin. This. This is a prophecy about Xian Yin. Xian Yin is in danger. Return to the sect on your own. Since you've reached the fifth rank, you can fly through the air. I have urgent matters and must leave first. Young Lord. Tell your master, I'll return in a few days. Understood. Few days earlier, as Jiang Xian Yin left seclusion. Few. I've reached the sixth rank, third heavenly layer. My realm has stabilized completely. That last time reading the heavenly book allowed me to break through multiple realms. I'm truly fortunate. From now on, I can be of help to Chao Ji. Finally, I can go see him. It's been several months since we last met. But this time, I won't leave his side again. There's one thing I must do before that. Congratulations, Junior Sister Xian Yin, on exiting seclusion and stepping into the sixth rank. You can now take the position of an elder in our Chun Chiu Mountain. Elder of Chun Chiu Mountain. Su Ping. Sixth rank, fifth heavenly layer. Thank you, Senior Sister Fong Jun, but I have no interest in titles or power. You know my true desire lies in food. How about I prepare a meal to celebrate your return from seclusion, then? There's no need for that today. I have urgent matters to see the sect leader and the holy saint about. Once this matter is settled, I'll drink with you, Senior Sister Fong Jun. Going to see Hangin again, what could she possibly have to discuss? She already has a Dao partner, why does she keep entangling herself with Hangin? Jiang Xian Yin, do you really think that no one else in this world matters as much as you? In the assembly hall. Jiang Xian Yin, have you really thought this through? Sect leader, I've made up my mind. I will no longer serve as an elder of Chun Chiu Mountain. I only wish to. To travel. I can't mention the MO sect. Everyone knows about my relationship with Chao Ge, it's too embarrassing. What? Travel? I bet it's to the M.O. sect. Young people these days are just so shy. She thinks we can't see through her, huh? She wants to leave? That's great. Hurry and go. Once you're gone, Hang Yin will finally notice me. In that case, I... Hold on. Xian Yin is surely heading to the M.O. sect to find sect leader Lu. But how would it look if she, a mere disciple of Chun Chiu Mountain, were to be associated with the sect master of the M.O. sect? It could make our sect appear petty. Elder Tsishin is right. Lu Chao Ge of the M.O. sect is now a famous prodigy. It would be inappropriate for a disciple to be matched with him. He might even suspect we're deliberately lowering Xian Yan's status, thinking we look down on him, which wouldn't be good. But if junior sister Xian Yin remains an elder, she would have to fulfill her duties in Chun Chiu Mountain. This would take up much of her time. That wouldn't be convenient for the two of them to be together, would it? So, Holy Saint, do you have a solution? We can create a special venerated deacon position for junior sister Xian Yin. Apart from large sect gatherings, she wouldn't need to follow sect orders. She would be on equal footing with the other elders. This would free her from her official duties while also letting Sect Master Lu of the M.O. Sect know that Junior Sister Xian Yin holds a special status. Excellent. The Holy Maiden's suggestion is brilliant. Perfect. 
This solves Junior Sister Xian Yan's problems while maintaining the dignity of Chun Chiu Mountain. Jian Xian Yan, from this day forward, you are the venerated deacon of Chun Chiu Mountain. Apart from major sect gatherings, you won't need to follow the sex orders and will be on equal footing with the elders. Thank you all for your kindness. They made an exception for her. Why do they favor her so much? I'm just as good as she is. No. Tonight, I will make Hang In understand my feelings too. Fong Jun, why are you drinking so much today? Is something on your mind? I'm not troubled, I just feel, for some reason, that your spring slumber is particularly delicious today. Fong Jun, are you sad to see me leave? Xian Yin, once you leave, will you still remember me, your sister who entered the sect with you? Fong Jun, you know what kind of a person I am. The only person in my heart is Chao Ji. Jiang Xian Yin, you're still as cold as ever, just like before, never paying attention to me. In youth, in this sect competition, Jiang Xian Yin and Su Fong Jun have tied for first place. I was always just a little short. Even when I was only a bit behind, and even though our teachers saw us as equals. Junior Sister Xian Yin is truly amazing. Junior Sister Xian Yin really deserves her title as the genius of Chun Chiu Mountain's physical cultivation. Even though the final strike was delivered simultaneously, it was clear that Senior Sister Xian Yin won by a fraction. How could the judges be so biased? But that tiny difference meant no one's gaze would ever fall on me. No one would ever notice me. No one would ever take me seriously. Xian Yin, I've always known your personality is cold. I shouldn't have asked a question. I have other matters to attend to, so I'll be leaving early tonight. After tonight, we may only meet again after the great sect event, Senior Sister Fong Jun, take care. Perhaps. Xian Yin, take care. You better die in the coming calamity and never see me again for all eternity. Sect leader, you are in quite the mood today? May I join you? Today, I feel like having a drink as well. As you wish. Is this because junior sister Jian Xian Yan is leaving the mountain? Seems like I guessed right again. Hai Ying, you should know that junior sister Xian Yin already has a Dao partner. So what? She's not the only good woman in the world. There are many others. Why insist on? I don't like you. Senior brother Hai Ying, don't joke like that. Someone like me. Could hardly be considered a good woman, right? He he. I'll take my leave first. Su Fong Jun, there's still time to turn back. Reaching the seventh rank in physical Koltai Vadion is like reaching for the heavens you can't force it. Understood. Thank you for the reminder, sect leader. Hurry and get to Marshal Aunt Xian Yan. She's leaving tomorrow, and you won't be able to give her your gifts. Hey! Wait! I've also prepared a gift for Marshal Aunt Xian Yan. Marshal Aunt Xian Yin once gave me guidance and helped me break through a bottleneck I'd been stuck on for a long time. I must see her one last time today. Hurry up. Let's go. Jiang Xian Yin, Jiang Xian Yin. Jiang Xian Van, I want you dead. The next day at Chun Chiu Mountain. Everyone, I will take my leave. Travel safely. Thank you. Where's Su Fong Jun? She was the closest to Xian Yin. She's probably off somewhere, in sorrow. If that's the case, then it's a good thing. I'm just worried. Marshal Aunt Jiang, wait for me. Stop. You still have more training to do. Don't run around. Master, I want to go to the MO Sec too. I want to see Marshal Uncle Lu. Wah. Three months later, Qingzhou border. Chao Ji, 
I'm about to see you. This is the Beijo's border. Once I cross this place, I'll be in Qingzhou. That is. Feng Jun? Elder of Chun Kiwi Mountain, Jiang Xian Yan, I've been waiting here for you for a long time. The one Su Xiang was waiting for is her? A sixth rank, third layer physical cultivator, not impressive at all. For a human physical cultivator like this, we sure have sent a lot of people. Su Xiang is being too cautious. Feng Jun, do you know who these people are? Why are you with them? Of course I know. Because I am also a member of the Yellow Springs Society. Let me add one more thing. My rank is Xiang quite high in the Yellow Springs Society. You've betrayed Chun Chiu Mountain? Yes, and it's all your fault. Kill her. Su Xiang, this physical cultivator looks good. I want to eat the tenderest part of her body. I'll take her head. Her flesh will be a great tonic for me. Ha ha ha. Faster. Go faster. I smell blood. Where is it? Jiang Xian Yan, you are still as strong as ever, but unfortunately, you, a great genius of her generation, are about to fall. Let me personally send you off. I want to know why. Why did you betray Chun Chiu Mountain? Why, why does she still act so righteous, even when facing death? How dare you question me when you're about to die? Jiang Xian Yan, you've got some nerve. Fine, I'll tell you. I didn't betray Chun Chiu Mountain. Chun Chiu Mountain betrayed me. Is it because of Hang Ying? Him? He's just a part of it. It's all because of you. In this examination, Jiang Xian Yan and Su Feng Jun have tied for first place. Su Feng Jun Jiang Xian Yan. Since we entered the sect, you and I have been called the twin stars of Chun Chiu Mountain. In this sect competition, Jiang Xian Yan and Su Feng Jun have tied for first place. There was never a winner between us. It was always a tie. Wow. It's the Chun Chiu twin stars. They're both so beautiful. Senior sister Jiang is so cool, and senior sister Su is so gentle. Whether it was cultivation, appearance, personality, or even popularity in Chun Chiu Mountain. You and I were always equals. But at some point, Hang Ying, the Grand Elders, the Holy Saint. Their attention was only on you. Everyone favored you. Even Hang Ying was rumored to have feelings for you. I couldn't understand why, so I went to ask the Holy Saint. You and Xian Yin are no different, except your jealousy has been amplified by the cultivation technique. Stay away from her, and everything will be fine. That was the Holy Saint's answer. So I started to avoid you. I stopped interacting with you altogether, until... Until that man appeared. He dared to challenge the sect leader of Chun Chiu Mountain. For you. I saw him and Hang Ying fight to death. I was consumed by jealousy, and I hated it. I hated it so much. Why would someone go to such lengths for you? Did you know, the day before Hang Ying fought Lu Chao Ge, I went to see him. Hang Ying saved my life once. He rescued me from a demonic cultivator, so I thought he liked me. Xian Yin already has a Dao partner now. Hang Ying, what do you think of me? His refusal was silent. He didn't even say no to me. Do you know? How humiliating that was. It's all because of you. Everything I lost, I'll take it back from you. No, you didn't lose anything. It's your jealousy that's driven you mad. Fifty, what if it has? I'm jealous. So what? Who's there? What's wrong? I'm fine. It's been a long time. Don't talk for now. This is a healing pill. It works well. I'll stop the bleeding with my water element power, though it might feel a bit strange. 
I just exchanged some healing pills from the system. They're of the highest grade. They should restore a lot of Xian Yan's blood. She's in a terrible state. It's fine. I came here to see you. Now that I've seen you, I can die without regrets. You still have to give me children, weave cloth, and tend the fields. Don't even think about dying. If I do everything, what will you do? Me? I'll be busy making babies, of course. Uh. So many demonic cultivators. Is this the Yellow Springs cult from Beijo? That's a traitor who is an elder of Chunchio Mountain. Good, I'm very angry right now. Angrier than I've ever been. A demonic cultivator and a traitor. Good. Lu Chao Ge, don't think just because you've reached the sixth rank, you can defeat us. These are my elite forces. The way you two show affection is disgusting. Su Xiang, when you catch him, his face belongs to me. You're dreaming. That face is the essence of that brat's whole body. A mere sixth rank sword cultivator? I've eaten plenty of those. Do you remember that year when I was severely injured by Chi Quan and you told me to wait for ten breaths? Back then, I saved you. Now it's your turn to save me. Yeah. Just give me ten breaths. All right. Two domains release. Anyone who harms my Dao partner will be killed without mercy. His sword strikes are full of momentum, but sword cultivators are always flashy and impractical. Three sixth rank demonic beasts, plus three sixth rank demonic cultivators, what can a mere sixth rank sword cultivator do? So what if you are the famous Lu Chao Ge of Tianxian? If the renowned Lu Chao Ge of Tianxian falls by my hand, perhaps my rank in the Yellow Springs cult will rise, and I'll step into the sure rank. Jiang Xian Yan's blood is truly the freshest and most delicious. As long as she dies, my Tao heart will be completely clear. Judging by the dispersing spiritual energy, she's over there. I'm coming to kill you now. Chun Chiu Mountain? Jiang Xian Yan? Hang in. They're all stepping stones on my path to ultimate power. One day, I'll have all of Chun Chiu Mountain groveling at my feet. I'll have Hang Yan licking my boots. You're not dead. You're still not dead either. Where are they? There's no way you killed them all. I thought so too, but they were just too weak. This. This. How is this possible? Chao Ge is far stronger than when we last met. Although his realm isn't as high as mine, his strength is beyond me now. He once said he couldn't break through my defenses, but now... He's definitely going to say something cocky. That guy is really strong. I'm afraid I can't beat him. My only option now is... Achi. A sixth rank peak demonic beast, huh? I can slay with a single slash. Trying to escape? It's just a mere demonic beast. I'll catch one and refine it later. First, I need to save my life. Jiang Xi and Yin, we're bound to meet again. I'll kill you when the time is right. Su Xiang, where are you going? Master Ma Shu, you've come just in time. Lu Chao Ge is here. Come, help me kill him. He's a sure rank powerhouse, probably already in the seventh rank. Dealing with Lu Chao Ge should be a breeze. The Yellow Springs General instructed me not to interfere with your matters, but I can still assist you. Take this. This. What is it? An ancient demonic beast, Night Fong. Master, wait. How do I use this? What? No. No. 
No. Save me. Save me. The woman's aura disappeared here. It seems she's inside that black cloud. Beast claws? Ancient Demonic Beast Nick Fong L65 Description, an ancient fiend, one of the ancestors of demonic beasts, enjoys devouring human flesh and blood. Its cries resemble the singing of young girls. It has the same aura as the one I encountered before, the Red Owl, an ancient demonic beast. If I'm not mistaken, that woman's body has already been consumed by it. Let's probe its defenses first. Ordinary sword strikes don't seem to affect it. Let's see how strong you really are. This treasure I brought from the Eye of Chaos. Just how powerful are you? Don't disappoint the Yellow Springs General. Most of my wounds are healed. I have no idea where Chao Ge got such a powerful healing pill. I wonder how the battle is going now. What kind of demonic beast is that to be fighting evenly with Chao Ge? No, Su Fong Jun is part of the Yellow Springs Society. There must be an ambush. Chao Ge, I'm coming to help you. What the hell are you shrieking about? This ancient demonic beast's level isn't that high, but my sword chi isn't very effective against it. It's healing itself just like my human immortal physique it's annoyingly resilient. There must be something special about it. If only I could figure out its weakness. Feature upgrade available. Why did a feature unlock notification pop up now? I'll check it out. Host level is now 61. The previous, detect, feature can be upgraded to, advanced detection. Advanced detection J, allows detection of the current target, providing more detailed information, but the target's level cannot exceed the hosts by more than 10 levels. Why didn't you tell me about this sooner? Host did not ask you he. What are you laughing at? Activate advanced detection now. Trying to ambush me. Detection results. Ancient Demonic Beast, Nick Fong. Description, created from the Eye of Chaos using a Demonic Beast pseudo skin, devouring Su Fong Jun's transformed body. Level, 6th rank, 5th heavenly layer, same level as the devoured host. Abilities, can emit black flames, control black flames, high resistance to spiritual attacks, and convert spiritual energy into black flames to heal itself. However, it has low resistance to physical attacks. So, it's weak to physical attacks, but highly resistant to spiritual ones, and it can convert its opponent's spiritual energy into healing. I can't rely on Sword Chi to fight this thing. Wow, advanced detection is so much better than the basic version. Warning! The Night Fong is about to release its ultimate skill, Black Flame Annihilation. Its speed has increased by 100% and its damage by 100%. Please be cautious, host. An ultimate move. It's been a while since I've gone all out in a sword duel. Let's see whose attack is stronger. Life Sword. Each strike increases damage by 1%. Stackable up to 50 times. Death Sword. Each kill increases killing intent by 1%, which can be converted into critical damage. Stack able up to 50 times. Water Affinity. When the sword is imbued with water, damage is increased by 15%. Sword weight decreases by 15%. Monster Slayer. Increased damage dealt to monsters and demonic beasts is increased by 10%. Slow Sound Serious Strike. A slow slash dealing 200% damage. Chao Ge, Xian Yin, you arrived just in time. Your pure body refinement technique is the natural nemesis of this ancient demonic beast, Night Fong. What? 
I'm its natural enemy? Trust me, don't use spiritual energy. Just clash with it directly using your strength. All right. It seems this skin grants the parasitized host the original beast's abilities. If the Yellow Springs general knew this, he'd be thrilled. I'll be rewarded again. If the Night Farm kills both of them, I'll have accomplished a great feat. The most famous rising stars of the Tianqian realm, Lu Chao Ge and his Dao partner, both dying at the hands of the Yellow Springs cult. Our cult will dominate the other three demonic sects. The Purple Moon cult, monster spirit cult, they won't dare look down on us anymore. Instant Karma Damn it! As expected of a pseudo-beast, it's not worth much. That's Su Fong Jun. This demonic beast turned out to be her transformed form. She may be a traitor, but she likely has some connection with Xian Yan, which could spark some feelings. Chao Ji. Look! She's just harvesting the skin. Looks like there's no sentiment left for traitors. This skin. It looks a lot like the one that appeared after the Red Owl's death years ago. I think so too. It's strange it can turn a living cultivator into a demonic beast. What exactly is this thing? No need to guess. Since we don't understand it, let's find someone who does. Ask? Who should we ask? There's no one here. Hey, you didn't actually think I hadn't noticed you, did you? Hey, hey, hey. I'm surprised that sect leader Lu noticed me. I thought I was hidden quite well. Sect leader Lu's perception is truly sharp. As expected of the most prominent rising star in Tianchuan's cultivation world. My domain can indiscriminately absorb the spiritual energy of everything around me. Your spiritual energy reeks of demonic cultivation. Also, to be frank, your energy stinks like rotten eggs. You. He <laughs> he. You're the first person to speak to me like that. I admire your courage. Chao Ge, be careful. This man's spiritual energy feels distinctly demonic, and his rank is far higher than ours. He's already in the seventh L rank. The higher the rank, the greater the gap hits like an insurmountable chasm. He's incredibly powerful, so proceed cautiously. All right, let's probe him first. System, Advanced Detection With advanced detection, as long as their level isn't too much higher than mine, the system can provide valuable information. Okay. Beep. But I'm not in the mood to banter with you right now. The beast skin you acquired belongs to me. Please return it. If you do, I might be in a good enough mood to only eat one of you. John Ku. Yellow Springs Cult, High Rank Member. Level, 73, 7th Rank, 3rd Heavenly Layer. Description, Demonic Heart Buddha, Heartless and Treacherous, Kills Without Mercy. He once devoured the family of someone who saved his life and even ate the entire clan of a close friend. Difficulty Level, a zero zero. So, you're a treacherous demonic cultivator from the Yellow Springs Cult. In that case, I won't be returning anything to you. Besides, being eaten by something as ugly as you would definitely give me nightmares. A Yellow Springs cult member. He must have manipulated Su Fong Jun. You. For someone with such good looks, sect leader Lu Shur has a filthy mouth. Let me grant your wish. My dear disciple, come out and enjoy your meal. Heh heh, master. Is it already meal time again? Advanced detection. Papi Yashas. Purple rank demonic beast. Level, 71, seventh rank, first heavenly layer. Description, a powerful demonic beast of the rare humanoid type from the demonic beast realm. A purple rank demonic beast? This is the first time the system has shown a ranking for a demonic beast. 
Even ancient beasts and primeval demonic beasts never triggered this kind of ranking in the system. What's so special about it? Chow GE, I'll handle the demonic beast. You take on the demonic monk. Xian Yin, wait. There's something strange about that demonic beast. The system ranked it as a purple rank demonic beast. There is likely some trickery involved. Ah. It hurts. It hurts so much. I'm going to die. Huh? Is this thing really a purple rank beast? My disciple, don't fear the pain eater. Her flesh is delicious. This fat guy isn't worried at all, even though his demonic beast is struggling. He's not even making a move. Just to be safe, I should strike first and kill him. Once I get rid of him, that purple rank demonic beast won't be a problem. He actually blocked my sword. Sect Leader Lu, I am a cultivator of the seventh rank. Without a certain degree of power, I would have been eliminated by the so-called righteous cultivators long ago. Someone at the sixth rank like you is no match for me. This fat guy's defense is incredibly strong. I need to figure out how to break through his defenses. My master told me to eat you, so don't move. You're annoying. What? Ouch. My head hurts. Stop stabbing me. Master, I can't catch her. Master, my head hurts. Chao Ge, the demonic beast is dead. I'm coming to help you. It was even marked as a purple rank demonic beast, but it was this week? Amitba, you too have no trace of mercy left in you, so don't blame me when the Yikshas bring calamity upon the world. Nonsense. Spewing such things as a demonic cultivator. Hmm. Don't hurt my master. Humph. System, detect. Black Yiksha, 6. Description, one of the three Yikshas, known for its reckless and foolish nature. It possesses immense strength, specializes in physical combat, wields a terrifying ghost-headed trident, and has a powerful physique, making it unmatched in ferocity. Red Yiksha, vid. Description, another of the three Yikshas, known for its playful and mischievous nature. It wields a powerful fire gourd, capable of spewing intense flames. Its strength lies in the gourd, which is tied to its life force, making it part of its body as a demon cultivator. Green Yiksha, VU Description, the third of the three Yikshas, known for its proud, sinister, and poisonous nature. It controls thunder and lightning and carries a divine lightning silk ribbon. The smallest of the three, it floats and can summon thunder attacks, making it the strongest of the trio. So it can split into three. These three are its true forms. No wonder it's ranked as a purple rank beast. Now, the advantage is mine. For a hundred years, no one has seen the true forms of the three Yikshas. Now they'll serve as the perfect executioners for sect leader Lu and his wife Wat a fitting end. So fast. Ha ha ha. Master, this is fun, so fun. Roast them well, make them crispy and delicious. It broke through my protective aura. This demonic beast is strong. I was too careless. Xian Yin is in danger. This demonic beast is extraordinary. Xian Yan's strength lies in body refinement, but in a spiritual battle, she'll be at a disadvantage. I need to help her deal with the flames first. Stab it deep. Only then will it be flavorful. I'll stab. Stab. Stab it. This creature's speed is incredible, and each attack is powerful. In terms of physical strength alone, it rivals Ning Jianshan. A mere sixth rank sword cultivator and spear wielder dare challenge us? Come, it's time for you to join the fight. Fine. 
Once we kill them, I want a hundred living humans. No problem. After we finish here, I'll head to the city in the northern province and catch some for you. That guy is the fat one's trump card. At this rate, Xian Yin won't hold out much longer. In that case, let's try Divine Ascension. I happened to slay some eagle feather monsters with it recently. However, I haven't yet tested its true power. Stab you through. Wah! Lightning Fury. Damn. Such a huge force if I get hit, I'll definitely die. Chow G, run. Chow G. Is that really my Chow G? Such a powerful cultivator. What's up with that kid? How is he able to block your lightning fury? We need to go. I can't kill him. Lightning fury will only stall him briefly. Once the lightning stops, we'll be dead for sure. What? I will surely die. But what about you? Don't you care about the black yiksha and red yiksha? I will die too, but... Let me eat some humans first. You. The three yikshas. I spent nearly a hundred years cultivating them into top tier demonic beasts, and now the red and black yikshas are just being discarded like that. This Lu Chao Ji owes me a blood debt. Black yiksha. That. That guy. Is he really just a human cultivator? Keep watching, and you'll die too. The feeling of Ascend God is strange. I need to hurry. The world I see is already warped. Chao Ji, thank you. Chao Ji. W what's wrong with you? Chao Ji. What's wrong? Wake up. Chow. G. Chow G E. If I were to die by your hand, I would have no regrets. Why? Why is this monster crying? Who? Are you really? Hey, you've already sensed my presence. At least give me a glance, won't you? You. Are you a fellow transmigrator? That's right, just like you. Too bad though, we're still not in the same world. Who are you then? Me. Who am I indeed? So many years have passed, I've almost forgotten. Was it 20,000 years? A hundred thousand years? Or a million? It all feels about the same. But that doesn't matter. What I'm really looking forward to is the moment I finally meet you. So, it's not yet your time to step into this world. You're more interesting than that guy, so I want to give you a little more guidance. Do you want to know who that guy is? No, I don't. You. You're not playing along at all. But I'll tell you anyway, that guy. You all call him Emperor Ching. I guessed as much. You are both interesting and boring. Chow. Chow Ji. Are you awake now? So divine ascension changes your perception of this world. I couldn't even recognize you. What did I look like in your eyes back then? I'm sorry, it was too strange. I can't describe it. How strange could it be? There are other transmigrators in this world, just like me. That person didn't have any identifiers above his head, so I'm certain he's not a player. Even though I was a devoted player in my previous life, no one ever knew where the game Tianxian Realm came from, not even the person running it. 
I once tried to pay the official developers to change my level and surpass the level 60 cap, but there wasn't even a customer service representative. Who exactly is that guy? Chow Ji. Just now. I didn't tell you because I was embarrassed. My back was also a little bruised. Can. Can you apply some medicine for me? Master's back. It feels so smooth and soft, just like I thought. W.Y. does his hand on my back make me feel. So strange. My heart is pounding fast, and I can't breathe right. Sinyan, we've been Dao companions for a long time. I, I know. Between Dao companions, we're only missing that final step. There's no better time than now. I. But I. If you feel it's not right, I won't force you. Don't worry, everything will happen naturally. I made a promise with Lu Chaoga. Once he reaches the seventh level, I'll share my power with him. Chaoga is already at the sixth stage. With his talent, reaching the seventh stage is just a matter of time. Senior sister has lost her mind, and she's capable of anything. We can't let her beat us to it. All right. No better time than now. The sound of the phoenix flute echoes, jade cups sparkle, and the night is filled with dancing. Master's taste is really amazing. I never thought she'd be so forward. Now, I've really tamed her. Aw, oh, so embarrassing. How? How can he stay up all night without sleeping? Note. The bamboo bed was something Lu Chaoga brought with him. He had everything prepared in advance. So sneaky. But he went out early this morning. I wonder what he's doing. Why hasn't he come back? It smells so good. That fish soup smells amazing. The fish soup is ready. Do you want to try some? I just caught the fish and made sure to remove all the bones. The fish soup you made. I have to try it. It smells so good. I don't know how you made it. Of course it smells good. I made it just the way you like it. Thank you. But there's something. I've been meaning to tell you. I've been thinking about it for a while. Go ahead. Su Fongjun has betrayed us. The Yellow Spring sect has sent another expert. I'm afraid something bad might happen to Chuenchio Mountain. I can't go to the M.O. sect for now. I suspect. There's still a traitor in Chuenchio Mountain. I have to go back. When you go back, how will you find the traitor? I haven't figured that out yet. No need to rush. I've left spiritual energy traces along the way. That fat monk won't give up easily. He will definitely come back with the traitors from Chuenchio Mountain. With this item in hand, he won't stop. If this item falls into Chuenchio Mountain's hands, they could rally all the cultivation sects in the northern region to attack the Yellow Spring sect. But if there's a traitor stronger than Su Fong Jun in Chuenchio Mountain, how will the two of us deal with it? Don't worry, I'm ridiculously strong. This time, Mohan asked for our help in a hurry. Do you know what happened? You'll find out when you meet him. The whole village reeks of blood. That monster is at it again. You two are here. Would you like to try some? I'm warning you, we're close to Chuenchio Mountain. Don't make too much noise. Otherwise, even we won't be able to protect you. You can't protect me, but that person can. If our plan works, all of Chuenchio Mountain will be yours. Did that person come today? Shut up. This small matter doesn't need him to get involved. Don't forget, we're just working together. I'm not your subordinate to boss around. We're on the same side, don't ruin the peace. Now, what's the issue? It's Lu Chaoga and Chuenchio Mountain's female deacon. They killed Su Fong Jun and took a secret treasure from our Yellow Spring sect. That treasure must not be revealed. If it is, disaster will follow. 
Not only will your identities be exposed, but even that person could be dragged into this. Then we'll kill them. Where are they now? My Chin Yasha can sense spiritual energy easily. Finding them will be no problem. Let's not waste time. Let's go kill them now. Their spiritual energy. It's coming from that cave. Then. Attack. With this, Jiang Xinyan and Lu Chaoga are as good as dead. Brother Ming Lei, you're truly amazing. Oh? Is that so? Two traitors at once. Chuenqiu Mountain is really full of spies. Ming Lei, Brother Zhang. Is that you? Dare to show yourselves. It's me. As expected, Sister Jiang recognizes us. We can't hide. Do you recognize them? Brother Ming Lei is the head elder of our punishment hall at Spring and Autumn Mountain. He is strict and fair, and he hates evil. The number of demon cultivators and strange beasts he has killed is not less than 800. Brother Zhang is an elder from the cultivation hall. He is diligent and has never made a mistake. But why have both of them betrayed us? You two brothers, we at Spring and Autumn Mountain have treated you well. Why is it like this? Ha, huh, treated well? If what Sister Jiang said is true, why would we take the huge risk to collude with demon cultivators? Why waste words with them? Let's work together to kill them and take back the Night Fong skin. Then no one will know who you are. That's true. Sister Jiang, I'm sorry. Chaoga, where are the reinforcements you mentioned? Reinforcements? Where would they come from? Still pretending at the moment of death. No one can save you now, even if you scream. You need to go to the nearest cultivation sect right now and call for their help. They will be our reinforcements. Now? Why not earlier? If we did it earlier, we wouldn't achieve our goal. Hurry up. I can handle them alone and can at least hold on until you arrive. But, but, don't forget, I have that technique. If I use Chavez's technique here, it might actually hold him back. Since that's the case, I might as well listen to him. He has never made a mistake, this time will definitely be the same. Yes. Chauga, wait for me to come back. Go after her and kill her. Yes. Singing LV-70. Regular spear cultivator, not a body cultivator, has a yellow level domain, flower tree fragrance realm. No special treasures. Sixth realm, great perfection, ordinary spear cultivator, the domain is just yellow level, XIN Yin can handle it. This advanced detection is really useful, it can even detect those without special treasures. I wonder if this advanced detection can be upgraded again? Lu Chauga, you don't have the luxury to care about others now. Even if you use that technique from last time, this time you will definitely die. Who said I would use that technique again? You won't need that technique. Before your reinforcements arrive, you will turn to dust under my lightning. Who said I really let her seek reinforcements? What I did just now was just to distract her. Distract her? Why do that? You should know that doing this will only make you die faster. Because I am summoning the fourth calamity army. Disciples of the MO sect, show yourselves. What the heck? Is this task for real? Master Lu. Look over there. It's Master Lu. I can actually fight alongside Master Lu to defeat a boss. This isn't a dream, right? I'm glad I didn't log off, otherwise, I would have missed it. Wow. Three big bosses, what the heck, three level seven bosses. If we clear this dungeon, the rewards will be amazing, I can't even imagine. The MO6 task release system actually has a system NPC exclusive bug, as long as I set the task target and create a boss battle. 
I can directly pinpoint coordinates to teleport players into the battlefield and turn this place into dungeon mode. Also, I can define resurrection points in the dungeon, allowing players to respawn endlessly. Hee <laughs> hee, although they are weak, thousands of MO sect players who can respawn infinitely can wear them down just by outlasting them. Not to mention there are also some professional players among these players who are incredibly skilled. Let's truly feel the terror of the fourth calamity. How can there be so many people? Something feels off, there are no fluctuations of spiritual energy. Just a bunch of trash, let's kill them all. Disciples of the MO sect. Listen up. Those participating in this battle will receive at least one yellow level sword embryo. Those who perform greatly in this battle will receive a blue level sword embryo and a volume of sword techniques. Yes. Just by participating, there's a yellow level sword embryo. Wow, the master is 50 generous. Kill, kill, kill. The blue level sword embryo and sword technique are my goals. This mere level 71 boss? I can defeat it no problem. Let's go, brothers, let's do this. Today, we will take down the demon guards. Drawing Xian Yin away is to prevent her from knowing there's a group of immortal players in the MO sect, otherwise. She might think I'm some evil villain too. However, aren't the outsiders also considered evil? What the heck are these guys? Why can we kill them endlessly? I just killed this guy earlier, how is he back again? Kill him. He's alive again. What are these things exactly? And, I don't know when it started, but my spiritual energy has been constantly draining. What on earth has Lu Chaoga done? Ah, it's 50 numb. It hurts so much. This electric shock feels so real. Damn. So this is what it feels like to get struck by lightning. Look, I slashed it and it's bleeding. This thing's a beast and every MIT gives me experience points. So satisfying. We've cleared all the small monsters around Danching Mountain, and now we finally get to fight some big bosses. As a sword cultivator of the Momen sect, I'm going to use all my strength on this thing. These guys. They don't seem like cultivators at all, they're more like lunatics. I need to find a chance to escape. Even though they're like ants, they just won't die, and there's no end to them. What are these creatures? Why are they acting more like monsters than me, a demon cultivator? This fat monk has so much health. Everyone. Keep hitting him. Luckily, he doesn't have much attack power, just dodge his skills. Healers, make sure to keep our tanks alive. Don't just charge in, remember to use your potions. If I'm right, the reinforcements Pei Chanchian called should be arriving to help Sing in soon. Actually, the closest cultivation sect is a place I already arranged. Once spring and autumn arrive, the head will emerge from the wooden door. Responding to Ching Hang's words, there is no way to eliminate the traitor. Ah, Senior Bielu Ren, are you telling the truth? The other guests haven't said anything about him for a long time, so it must be true. Cool. Yes, go find the master. Chumyumin is a small sect in Beizhou, right? Seems it's on the border between Beizhou and Qingzhou. There's a traitor in Chuenqiu Mountain. Something big is about to happen. Tomorrow, I will definitely take first place with my master. If anyone dares touch Uncle Qing, I won't let them get away with it. No one can escape, even if they have good skills. Thank you for your guidance. I will take care of it now. Everything is going according to my plan. I need to hurry up. Just outside the water gate is the closest cultivation sect. Even though they're not very strong, they can quickly send people to notify the others. The more people we gather, the better our chances of winning. Chowga, I'll catch up. Please don't let anything happen to you. Oh no, it's a barrier technique. 
Domain Flower and Tree Fragrance Realm. Damn it! Sister Sinyan, although I'm older than you and know a few techniques, I'm not as skilled in body cultivation as you are. It's all just some tricks, not as impressive as your talent, Sister Sinyan. Brother Zhang, you hold a high position in the Chuenchio Mountains Cultivation Hall, and you're even an elder. Why did you betray us? Yeah, why did I betray? I hold a high position and am an elder in an important department. By right, I should want Chuenchio Mountain to thrive, right? But is it really as you say? I'm an elder of the Cultivation Hall, but there are places I can't even access. It's laughable. An elder of the Cultivation Hall can't freely enter the Cultivation Hall. Who are they guarding against? Those cultivation techniques are secret arts that only the Grand Master, the Sect Leader, and the Supreme Elders can practice. If you wait a few more years, you might join them too. Why do this? Wait more years? But I'm already 379 years old. I won't live that long. I'm dying. Brother Zhang, as cultivators, we should accept life and death with peace of mind. Nonsense. I've watched as the cultivation hall held all those life-extending techniques, but I can't practice them. Do you know how angry that makes me? I'm dying. And I can't save myself. All because of those stupid rules of Chuenchio Mountain. Sister Jiang, our plan is about to succeed. Once it does, I'll be able to extend my life. I'll be able to live longer. Since you found out, I have no choice but to use your life. Since it's come to this. Huh? What's happening? I can't move. This is paralysis poison. My domain, the flower and tree fragrance realm, is just a low-level domain, and its power isn't that strong. It just spreads paralysis poison to anything within 10 meters. But it has one feature it ignores cultivation levels. Even someone as strong as you, Sister Jiang, can't resist it. Sister Jiang, I've been talking to you this whole time, just waiting for the poison to take effect. Sorry about that. Your life. I'm taking it. Wait. Brother Zhang, I have something to say. What? Facing death, are you planning to betray Chuenchio Mountain too? No, I want to know, what exactly is your plan? Since you're about to die anyway, I suppose there's no harm in telling you. We're going to overthrow Chuenchio Mountain and rebuild its rules with a new sect leader and grandmaster. But the Grandmaster and Sect Leader are so powerful, how do you plan to do that? The Yellow Spring Sect has a poison that's colorless and tasteless. Taking it once is no big deal, but if you take it every day, your body will weaken and your spiritual power will leak. We've been putting that poison into Chuenchio Mountain Spiritual Springs for over three years now without anyone noticing. In just half a month, the poison will fully take effect. At that time, the Grand Master and Sect Leader will be like sheep waiting to be slaughtered. I see. Such a deep plan. You betrayed Chuenchio Mountain long ago, but have been hiding it so well. What a pity, what a pity. There's no need to pity. You'll be the first to go, and they'll be following right behind you. Hang in. Why are you here? It was me who sent a voice transmission to Sinyan. Otherwise, I wouldn't have heard your grand plan. We've been here the whole time. What I'm best at is blending in with nature. If I want, even if I stripped all my clothes off, you wouldn't notice a thing. Sec Master Hang Ying is second only to the four saints, and with the Holy Master as well, my fate is sealed. The only way out of this situation is... Five Sec Master, each Holy Master, I was forced into this. It was. It was Grand Elder Ming who forced me into it. I, I never wanted to betray the sect. Is there anything else you wish to say? Sect Master Hang In. W when you were young, you came to the library to seek some techniques, and I helped you back then. D do you remember that? H Hang In. I am considered your teacher as well. 
Look at the sky. It looks so strange. What is going on? Perhaps there is a battle between cultivators. Let's hope it ends soon so that we, ordinary humans, aren't affected. What should we do with the remains of Elder Zhang? He has served the sect for so long. Even if he hasn't achieved much, he has devoted his life to the sect. Throw him into the spear formation and leave him there for eternity, so his remains may help sharpen the skills of our sect's disciples. Sect Master, Holy Teacher, Master Chaoga is still fighting over there. We must. Chaoga is still fighting? Is he even fighting seriously? Quick, stab him. When he loses enough blood, he'll lose his ability to move too. It doesn't matter what matters is getting Master Lu's reward. Are these men really human? Even if they don't fear death, their ability to keep returning to life like this. It's more brutal than we demon cultivators. Who would have thought that I, M.O. King, would die at the hands of such trash? What's wrong with these scoundrels? My spiritual energy is nearly exhausted to the point that I can no longer fly. What the hell is he scheming? Brothers, let's go. That monster leader has bled a lot. If we attack him a few more times, he's bound to fall. This guy is infuriating. If we can't take him down today, I won't be able to hold back my anger. Damn it, let's do it for the rewards. You demons. I'll fight you all. To the people of this world, these immortals are just like monsters. However, here I ing that from these genuine monsters of the seventh realm is somewhat amusing. These two have already reached their limits, but it seems that Qin Yasha still has some strength left to continue. Even if it's suppressing its spiritual power, if it continues like this, it won't be able to fight. As expected, it was wise not to use all its strength from the very beginning. M.O. King is on the verge of collapse, it won't last much longer. Since that M.O. King is about to fall, the contract will no longer hold any weight. As long as I'm still alive, I can simply seek out a new host. Master M.O. King, die alone, I don't want to die. I've been waiting for you. Are you trying to escape now? It seems the beasts have gained some cunning, that's not good news for demon cultivators. You have slain the beast, Qin Yasha. You have gained 29 million experience points. Oh my, the experience points gained from killing this beast are just a million less than those from Ning Jian. This reward is incredible. This means that Master M.O. King also has a significant experience point reward. I can't let them take this from me. I have to be the one to land the finishing blow. Step aside. Oh my god. Master Lu is incredibly strong. This is the first time I've seen Master Lu fight in person. I've only heard about his strength before. I can't believe I'm witnessing it myself today. The world destroying sword. Once we level up our cultivation, we'll definitely be able to do the same. I can't believe I witnessed Master Lu's sword strike in person. I have to engrave this in my memory. I can feel Master Lu's power. I can truly feel it. Oh my god. It feels incredible to fly like this. So this is what it feels like to fly. You have slain the demon, Xiu Mo. You have gained 26 million experience points. You don't have as much experience as that beast. What a lazy demon cultivator you are. Hint, search Shuemo's corpse. You might find something. Wow, it turns out he was hiding something. It's over. But before that, let's disable the dungeon mode first. The dungeon is complete. Rewards are being calculated. And the disciples are being transported back to the sect. Huh? Is it really over just like this? But there's still a boss that hasn't died yet. Oh man, it turns out that Master Lu is trying to take them down alone. We can't kill them at all. But it doesn't matter. The mission is complete anyway. What matters now are the rewards we'll receive. 
As I level up, the system functions are becoming more powerful and useful than before. So next, it's time to take the hidden item. What is this? This. This. This thing must never fall into his hands. Otherwise, that man will get. I was planning to take the item and then finish you off, but since you're seeking your own death so eagerly. It's done. It's safe. Even if I die, he will avenge me. Hey, don't be in such a hurry to close your eyes. Take a look at this. What is it? H. How is this possible? It was clearly. That was just a small illusion trick. You. You, give me. That thing. Ming Lei, do you know your crime? Hanin. I'm innocent. What crime did I commit? He was already at his limit, but his desire to kill you was immense. He was so decisive because he feared the soul search technique. It's likely there are still other traitors in Chun Chiu Mountain. Even someone like Ming Lei, a senior elder, was just a pawn. Humph. Too bad I killed Elder Zhang earlier, or else. People tend to lose their heads in anger. Even Hang Yin can be consumed by anger. After all, the feeling of betrayal is indeed hard to bear. Perhaps the clue you need is here. I already used advanced detection. Correspondence scroll. Scroll description. Contains restrictions. Cannot be opened without breaking the seal. Judging by the scroll, this must be correspondence between higher-ups of Chun Chiu Mountain and the Yellow Springs cult. Otherwise, someone as powerful as Moke, a seventh-rank cultivator, wouldn't carry it around. There's a high-level seal on this. Forcing it open might destroy it. It'll take some time, but I can break it in a few days. Then let's return to the sect and eliminate the remaining traitors. Wait, I've helped Chun Chiu Mountain with such a big task, and you're not even going to thank me? Thanks. Still holding a grudge for that time he hurt you? How could I hold a grudge? I'm the most magnanimous person. Sect Leader Lu, as expected, you're so generous. I'll head back to the sect now, farewell. Oh right, don't forget our agreement. After you reach the seventh rank, come find me. Huh? Why does that sound so strange? Feels like she's asking me to sneak around. Come with me. Where? To a cave. Huh? Cave? Three days later dash. Chow GE, I made fish soup for you to nourish yourself. Good. Good. I'll get up now. What's with that look? We're cultivators. Dual cultivation is beneficial. Don't think I don't know. I just didn't expect you to be so proactive three days in a row. I was just teasing you. I know about your agreement with the Holy Saint, and I know Chun Chiu Mountain's back mountain has a charm that can help prodigies break through. I also know that for the sake of Tian Qian, I can't stop you. I just want you to remember. You are, and always will be, my man. Jian Xinyan's man. My master, who was so aloof in my previous life, has completely changed. As expected, that coldness was just for outsiders. This side of her is reserved for someone special. I understand. Speaking of which, I've never tasted your cooking before. Today, I'll finally try it. It's my first time too. I followed a recipe I found. For a first try, it's amazing. As expected, my Sinyan is so talented. Really? Is it really that good? Well, the water tastes like water, and the fish tastes like fish. This isn't tasty at all. The Chun Chiu Mountain matter is settled. From now on, stay in the MO sect with me. Okay. The two of them are enjoying their sweet moment, unaware. 
that a great problem is approaching. Qingzhou, Endless Sea Once these blood threads reach the pupils, it will truly awaken. Us demonic cultivators and demonic beasts will then rule this world, free from the oppression of those human cultivators. Oh? But I heard that a sure from the Yellow Springs cult fell at the hands of MO6 Lu Chao Ge. I fear that human cultivators will rise faster than us. Lu Chaoga of the MO sect in Qingzhou is in the spotlight. We old folks need to find a way to take him down. But with Sword Sovereign backing him, who can make a move? He he he, according to my Purple Moon Cult's information, the Sword Sovereign has entered closed seclusion. Now is the perfect time. But even without the Sword Sovereign, there's still Ji Chan Kong, Li Suifong, and the Yinyang Sword Pool's master. Qingzhou sword cultivators are notoriously united. So, we'll need to be clever about it. Right now, there's a perfect opportunity. Qingzhou. Danqing Mountain. M.O. Sect. Chao Ge, are you serious? Can this really enhance my spear talent? Why does it sound so absurd? One's talent is determined at birth. How could this thing alter it? Besides, if it were truly a miraculous item, how would it end up in your hands? What, do you think it can't belong in my hands? I didn't mean that. Then try touching it. What's the harm? The locals of Tianxian have a different perspective on innate attributes. For a former player like me, attributes can be changed, which is why the talents of the four saints' disciples are so crucial. Well then, I'll give it a try. I can't keep turning him down, he's genuinely trying to help. This. This is. Steady your mind, accept it. I. I feel like I've truly changed. Jiang Xinyan, LV63. Description, the only venerated deacon of Chuenchio Mountain. Spear talent, 8 Kazakhstani Tenge Stamina, 8 Strength, 8 Agility, 7 Wisdom, 8 Evaluation, and Exceptional Physique for Body Cultivation. Sinyan's stats aren't particularly outstanding, but they're pretty good. Since I can boost her Spear Talent, I'll give her other attribute points as I gather them in the future. If you feel different, why not try it out now? All right. Sorry, I'm not yet used to this sudden increase in spear energy. No worries. With your talent, mastering it is only a matter of time. However, before that, there's some important business to attend to first. All MO sect disciples are gathered. Sect leader, please give your commands. Sister Jiang and my brother are officially Dao partners now. I'm not angry but I still feel like ignoring him. Sigh. I'll probably get used to it in a few days, it's just that I suddenly have a sister-in-law. Ever since I brought Sinyan back to the mountain, little Lizzy has been acting this way. I'll have to find a way to stop her from being so stubborn. All right, I have an important announcement today. M.O. Dongfang, step forward. Here, sect leader. Please instruct me. Starting today, You'll descend the mountain for training as a MO sect direct disciple. You may choose any outer disciple to accompany you as a servant. If you come across secret realms or treasures, collect them. Return them to the sect to strengthen our MO sect's power. MO Dongfang is incredibly fortunate, the true child of luck of Tianqian. He's perfect for treasure hunting and scouting. Sect leader, am I really worthy? This must be a major task. Is this MO sex test for me? Yes, you are. From now on, you will oversee all outer sect training matters for the MO sect. All outer disciples are at your disposal. Yes. I shall follow the sect leader's orders. Sect leader gave me such authority. I cannot disappoint him. Secondly, Luo Bing, do you remember your promise to me about showing your domain upon returning to the sect? Of course, I remember. Domain? Has Senior Sister Luo Bing reached the fifth rank? Senior Sister Luo Bing has become a great cultivator. 
You too, intensify your training so you can soon reach the fifth rank like your senior sister. Intensify? I feel like we're already going at full speed. Yes. Is this really something that training harder can fix? Yes. I shall follow master's orders. M.O. Sect, Arena. I will now demonstrate my domain. Please, sect leader and master. Guide me. She's always kept herself hidden. I suspect her domain may be related to her monster bloodline. But before that, I want to confirm something with sect leader and master. No matter what form Luo Bing may take, will Luo Bing always remain an MO sect disciple? Senior sister Luo Bing, if you're not one of our MO sect disciples, which sect are you from? Could it be? You're planning to go somewhere else? Junior sister Xiao Qiu, that's not what senior sister Luo Bing meant at all. You totally misunderstood her. It seems that during our trip to Luzhou, something significant has changed with Luo Bing. The change is so profound that she's even worried about whether we'd still accept her. Our answer is, of course. Siblings tacit understanding. No matter how you change whether you're human, monster, or something else, you will always be a disciple of the M.O. sect. I am your master, and he is your martial uncle. Luo Bing thanks master and martial uncle. Sect leader uncle, master, I. I have returned to my half-monster form. Senior sister Luo Bing grew fox ears and a tail. Those. Those are features exclusive to the demon clan. It's just as I thought. Even those closest to me are affected by my new identity. Senior sister Luo Bing looks stunning like this. Wow. I wish I had a tail too. Does this mean I have a half-monster senior sister? That's seriously cool. I heard there was once a prodigy in Qingzhou known as the Emperor Qing. He, too, was half-monster. Luo Bing is incredibly gifted and has such remarkable mentors, her potential is truly limitless. Everyone. So, no one minds that I'm different. This is wonderful. I worried for so long. This girl doesn't know how lucky she is. In my previous life, people would spend fortunes for authentic charms like these. If she showed up like this in front of players, they'd lose their minds. This is no cheap cosplay like Len Ari's. Well then, dear mentors, I'll proceed to display my domain. Please, guide me. This is my domain. While enhancing my abilities, it can summon a three-tailed fox spirit. It doesn't speak, but I feel an intimate connection, as if it's another version of myself in this world. This is an embodiment type domain. Such a domain is extremely rare. In all of Chuenchio Mountain, I've only heard that the previous holy saint possessed a similar domain. Brother, did you see anything special about it? Domained Celestial Paterned Fox Spirit S System Rating Class Effect 1 Celestial Paterned Fox Spirit Summons a Fox Spirit at the same level as the host, ready to fight for her without fear. Effect 2 Celestial Monster Physique Enhances all attributes by 25%. Description An exceptionally powerful domain with immense growth potential, rarely seen even among the Celestial Fox Clan's half-monsters. Impressive. Truly impressive. My little Lizzie's eldest disciple has become a formidable presence. A top-tier S-class domain with a summoned spirit, all attribute enhancement, and growth properties. Plus, she bears the nine aperture Ling Long heart. She'll certainly live up to the title of M.O. Sex Senior Sister in the future. If Luo Bing's domain is this extraordinary, I wonder what these two juniors' domains will reveal. It'll depend on their unique fortunes and opportunities. Luo Bing's domain holds limitless potential, and this is only its initial form. It will grow even more powerful in the future. With further training, the three-tailed fox spirit may even evolve into a nine-tailed fox. 
Luo Bing went on one trip with my brother, and she not only broke through ranks, but also awakened such an impressive domain. Looks like I'll be even safer here on the mountain. She hasn't changed one bit in that regard. Chaoga. Domli quickly lowered the mountain's defensive barrier. It's me. It's Aunt Ning's voice. Aunt Ning sounds flustered. Could something have happened to the sword sect? Sinyan, please wait here a moment. I'll be right back. Understood. Aunt Ning, what happened? Why are you in such a rush? Chowga, Donli, I apologize for my urgency. But something serious has happened that requires your immediate attention. Yu Yu is in trouble. He went to train in the sword prison over a month ago and has since lost contact with the elders who guard it. The sword prison is a training ground for disciples below the sixth rank, protected by formations that restrict anyone above that rank from entering. Sword prison. Several elders with sixth rank power have already gone in but haven't returned with you. you. I fear. He may have ventured into the deepest part of the sword prison. The deepest part of the sword prison. Master once mentioned that the sword prison ranks among the top three perilous training grounds of the sword sect. How could Yu Yue be so daring as to go that far? Chaoga's reputation in Tianxian has been rising rapidly with many legendary achievements. Even with his status as the sword sovereign's disciple with the flawless sword physique, he is being overshadowed. You know Yu Yu, he's always trying to compete with Chaoga, so. Did any of the searching elders bring back any news? No, none of them detected his spiritual energy at all. That kid. Among Tianchuan's four main protagonists, he's the most headstrong and the most trouble-prone. Without a spiritual energy signal, it's highly likely he's already. Chaoga, the situation is urgent. Right now, you're the only one who has a chance of rescuing Yu Yu. Don't worry, Aunt Ning, I'll go with you to the Sword Sex Sword Prison right away. Hold on tight, my little follower. I'm coming to save you. Let's not delay any longer. We'll set out now, and with my swift boat, it'll be faster for you to ride with me, Chao Ji. No, Aunt Ning, ride with me. Little Lizzie inscribed an array on my boat it might even be faster than yours. An array inscribed by Little Lizzie might be faster than my specially crafted one? Hee hee. Aunt Ning, just give it a try. This. Is it really Xiao Lizzie's array? So fast. It's like it elevated the boat's grade by a whole rank. Aunt Ning, I'm sure you've noticed by now how special Little Lizzie is, haven't you? Now, her multi-layered defense array at M.O. Sect is so formidable that even I could hardly break through it. When I say hardly, it's actually me, Aunt Ning now has no chance of breaking through Little Lizzie's defense array. That's true. Earlier, I tried to break the array to enter M.O. Sect quickly, but I couldn't do anything and had to use my spiritual power to call the siblings out. Little Lizzie's talent in array techniques is undeniable, but what's truly astonishing is that her array is so intricate and refined that it rivals my own sword sex defense array. Could MO sect still be counted as one of the bottom sects among the 300 sects under our sword sect? These two. They're simply one prodigy after another. It feels like I'm forgetting something. Oh, write the rewards for gathering M.O. sect players to sweep out the demonic cultivators. I forgot to distribute them. System, distribute rewards to all M.O. sect disciples who participated in the raid. Deduct all supplies from my storage ring. Okay. And let's throw in a few exclusive rewards to keep them motivated to serve me zealously next time. Demonic cultivators dungeon raid, dungeon rewards distributed. Finally. The rewards from the last raid on that dungeon bosses. I died 21 times in that fight. With the delay, I thought there was a system bug. Hush. Let's see what we got. All participating players earn 20,000 XP. A yellow grade sword embryo, which can be bonded to become your lifebound sword. A lifebound sword. A lifebound sword, holy crap. 
Yes. This is totally worth it. What's so great about sword embryos? I'd rather have something from our sect leader. You're a sword cultivator. How can you not love swords and only think of our sect leader? Shut up, Lu Chaoga is everyone's hubby. There's no way the exclusive reward would be just for you. Whoa. An exclusive reward, for real? A. A title? And it's limited to the top 10 players. I can't believe there's actually a hidden reward. The title. With this, everyone will know how amazing we are. I'm going to post about this. This is too good. I knew it. My hubby would never forget me. Eh. This. This is. Due to your outstanding performance in this raid, Yellow Grade Sword Embryo is upgraded to Blue Grade Sword Embryo. Special Reward, Sword Technique authored by Lu Chaoga, the Sword of Dominion, Yellow Tier, Unique. OMG, 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 OMG. Look, everyone. A unique sword technique, personally crafted by Lu Chaoga himself. And I'm the only one who has it. Are you selling it? Holy. I'm jealous. This. A lot of clickbaiters. Still, it certainly boosted my popularity. I hadn't anticipated the system would allow technique exchanges where I can use experience points to draw a technique that I then get to name. With freedom to name it, I can give even a low rank skill an epic name. That's not misleading, right? World Destroying Sword of the Heavens, Yellow Grade Lower. Divine Sovereign of Nine Dragons and Ten Phoenixes, Yellow Grade Lower. Celestial Spirit Art, Yellow Grade Lower. As everyone knows, low-tier techniques usually come with godly names. Not misleading at all. Even though Chaoga is gifted, he works hard too. Even at a time like this, he's still meditating and cultivating. The road he's walked hasn't been easy. Sigh. I should find an opportunity to talk to the sect leader, see if I can secure a better sword embryo for Chaoga and Little Lizzy. A lower grade sword embryo is just average now. It doesn't suit Chaoga anymore. Little did Lu Chaoga know, Aunt Ning was planning to pull some strings on his behalf so he could enjoy the benefits of having connections in high positions. Sword Sect High Rank Trial Ground Sword Prison Chaoga, there it is the Sword Sect's High Rank Trial Grounds, the Sword Prison. Our elders are waiting there already. Finally, you're here, Chaoga. I've been worried sick, and if it weren't for this formation crafted by the first sword sovereign, I'd have broken through it myself. Vice sect leader, even with your current strength, breaking this formation would be impossible. Sword sect deacon Ching Tai. Ching Tai, shut your mouth. All right, all right, let's not quarrel in front of the younger generation. When I killed Chen Chi last time, I crossed paths with this guy. Sword ECT's Deacon, in Tai. Sword Sect Elder, details in Chapter 221. Back then, he seemed so imposing. Now, I could defeat him in a single move. Hmm? What's going on with this boy? When I saw him a few years ago, he was only at the third rank. Now he's already reached the sixth. And yet. And yet. How is it that although my rank is higher than his, when I meet his gaze, I get shivers, a subtle pressure surrounding me? What kind of a monster is he? Rescuing you takes priority. I'll enter the array now. Wait. Elder Ching Tai and Elder Lu Yu have entered sword prison several times before. They'll clear the way for you to preserve your strength. This way, we'll have a better chance of retrieving you safely. Actually, I... I don't need these two to clear the way for me. Chaoga, listen to Aunt Ning. Saving you, you is important, but so is your safety. So that's what Aunt Ning was thinking. If I refuse their help, she might worry even more. All right then, I'll rely on your assistance, seniors. Of course. It's our duty, no need for thanks. Chaoga, please be careful. Senior Brother G. I can only reach the third level of sword prison now. How many levels could you reach when you were at the sixth rank? 
Back then, I could only reach the sixth level. But senior brother once reached the seventh level. Did he ever say anything about it? He said the seventh level was no different from the sixth and that his abilities were no different from mine. But I know he was just comforting me because that was the first time I'd seen him injured after attaining enlightenment. This barrier was set up by the first sword venerable. It only repels cultivators above the sixth realm and is harmless to those below the sixth realm. There's no need to resist. This person is simply doing their duty. Sect Leader Lu, beyond this barrier is the first trial of the sword prison, called Extreme Cold. This level is bitterly cold, so be extremely careful. Thank you for the warning. Will I need to make a move in this level? Absolutely not. Follow us closely and break through this level. These ice-formed human figures each have the strength of the fifth realm. Truly worthy of the sword sex sword prison. An ordinary sixth realm cultivator would not find such a trial easy. Sect Leader Lu, hurry and catch up with us. All right. The next level is called Fierce Poison. Hold your breath. Fierce Poison? What's so special about the poison used in the sword sex trials? It's calm and peaceful. Can we simply pass this level by holding our breath? Dodge it quickly. Once these poison fangs touch you, they can dissolve your cultivation. So it's a poison that can dissolve cultivation. It's indeed more dangerous than the previous level. It's still too easy. If it were you, you he wouldn't be injured by these things. Huff. Huff. Sect Leader Lu, the first two levels weren't difficult, but the third level is completely different. You're panting like that and it's not difficult. Are all the members of the Sword Sect known for their tough talk? How is this third level different from the previous two? This third level is called Blood Red and it's a trial of blood. The guardian spirit of this level will be at the peak of the sixth realm, and moreover, every inch of ground we're standing on is its domain. It's coming. From behind us. If something happens to us, take this opportunity to break through that door while we hold it off. Is it that strong? This level is the limit of what the two of U.S. can reach, Lu Chowga, don't be careless. This, this, this. Let's go to the next level. This. This is Lu Chaoga who's famous throughout Tianxian. That sword just now was beyond the power of the sixth realm. Truly is rumored. What, can you two only send me this far? Of course we can help you pass one more level. The fourth level is even more difficult and we can still help. Maybe we can't help. But I'm really curious about him. I'm also curious, just how strong will Lu Chaoga become? Is the fourth level about lightning? Yes, and no, the fourth level is called Thunder Penalty. This level tests your mind, so Lu Elder and I will go ahead of you to scout. Sect Leader Lu, we only have one chance, so you have to watch carefully. Humph, I suppose I'm mentoring the rising star of Tianqian? This is my first time here too, I don't know. What kind of illusions will appear? Wait, explain clearly, what is this place testing? It's confusion, the confusion in your heart. On the path of cultivation, one cultivates the body, techniques, and the mind. But cultivating the mind inevitably leads to confusion. The more confused you are, the more terrifying the thunder penalty here will be. Hundreds of years ago, a senior from the sect entered this level, but because he had too much confusion in his heart, 
he triggered the highest level of thunder penalty. Nine rounds of heavenly thunder penalty. That senior died on the spot. What is this confusion you speak of, this confusion gained through spiritual cultivation? My advancement is different from the native inhabitants of Tianqian. I rely entirely on experience points. I can level up as many times as I want. Even reach the peak of the sixth realm can be achieved in one thought for me. I've never heard of such a thing as confusion in the path of cultivation. Sec Master Lu, watch us as we face this confusion. I hope you can pass this trial. Sword servant you use life is in your hands. Wait, Yu is not family or close friend to you. He's just a fellow disciple. Why would you go this far, risking your life, for him? Because our Tao is nearing its end. But Yu Yu is different from us. His Tao has just begun. He will be the sword that raises Tian Qian, the future of swordsmanship that protects all beings. Compared to our lives, bringing him back is worth it. I see. As expected of the sword sect cultivators, the spirit of the sword cultivator lives on. In that case, let's use a special method. Even though the atmosphere has been built up to the point where someone has to die, it's always better if no one does. Senior, your righteousness is admirable. But I have a way to pass this trial without dying. Would you like to try it? Pass the trial without dying? Is there really such a way? Of course. Please follow me, seniors. So that's how it is. Truly, only Lu Chowder could have come up with such a plan. Don't worry, seniors. I have no confusion in my heart, so I don't face any thunder tribulation. I can easily handle the confusion of the two of you. Lu Chaobu is probably the only person without any confusion in his heart, but this way of passing the trial is a bit too humiliating. Although he saved me, why do I feel so stifled and resentful? As expected of me, I have no confusion at all. After all, I only believe in one principle. Any obstacle can be cut down with a single sword. If I can't cut it down today, I'll do it tomorrow. So, we've passed the fourth trial, Thunder Punishment. Ow. What's the next trial? The fifth trial. We've never heard of it or seen it. Oh? You too, as elders and deacons of the sword sect, don't know about this. This sword prison was originally set up for the Black Bamboo Forest lineage, but later, as the sword sect grew, it was opened up for all disciples to undergo trials. However, except for the disciples of the Black Bamboo Forest, basically no one can enter beyond the fourth trial. Therefore, the fifth, sixth, and seventh trials have always only been seen by sword venerables and their successors. Naturally, we don't know about them. I see. So old man G didn't tell me anything about the seventh trial. He probably did it on purpose because he doesn't know either. I guess he was afraid I'd enter the seventh trial and make him lose face. So only the current sword venerable has entered the seventh trial. Now Yu Yu has entered and I'll be entering soon. Let's go to enter the fifth trial. Is this the fifth trial? Puppets? It doesn't seem dangerous. Why are these things placed in the fifth trial? It's so boring. Be careful. Here they come. Hmm? Those two. They seem to be under an illusion. Is it Chowga? This feeling of spiritual energy, it must be Chowga. So, it's this kind of illusion. Chowga, my son, long time no see. Outside the sword prison gate. Senior Brother G, you said you've never seen what's beyond the fourth level. Can Chowga really handle it? He's far superior to me back then, of course he can. But the fifth level is a bit troublesome. How so? The fifth level is full of silk threads and puppets, but they're actually illusions. What it's really trying to show is the person you respect and admire the most. 
That person is usually very powerful, and the person constructed in that level is almost as powerful as the original, even their personalities are almost identical. I had a hard time in that level. Luckily, the constructed master was also kind-hearted, so I... Ugh. This tea tastes weird. Close call, I almost slipped up. So, the person Chaga admires the most is definitely the Sword Venerable. Can he really defeat Senior Sword Venerable now? So, after I was gone, you and Shaoli went through so many interesting things. Ha 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 ha. Good boy, you're truly my son, you even avenged me and your mother. And you're so handsome, just like me. Ha 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 ha. He's exactly like the father in my memory, but if I have to kill him to pass the level, can I do it? Come to think of it, I've been dead for a long time. Then, why am I here? We're currently in the Sword Sex Sword Prison. To clear this level, I guess I have to kill you. So that's how it is. So I'm just an illusion, huh? That explains everything. But you're exactly like my father. So, are you having a hard time doing it? I see. Chauga, it's been a long time since I've sparred with you. My hands are itching. Are you willing to fight me? Yes. Yu Yu is trapped here. I have to keep going to save him. Yu Yu is also here. Looks like Chauga, who couldn't even break through the initial realm back then, is now as T-Alented as the sword servant Yu Yu. Ha 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 ha. Then I'm even more curious. What has my son become? This illusion is more real than I imagined. He even remembers that I couldn't break through the initial realm when I was young. Be careful, Chauga. Ink sect swordsmanship, flourish. Ink sect swordsmanship, flourish. But this is all an illusion after all. As expected of my son, strong. Too strong. Stronger than your grandfather. You. How are you? I'm probably about to die, but would you lower your head so your father can pat you? Letting him pat my head. Could it be a trick of the illusion? Go ahead and pat. Okay, okay. Silly boy, I'm just an illusion. I've been dead for a long time. If you see your mother's illusion next time, don't be soft-hearted, remember that. I'm satisfied to see how much you've grown up, ha ha ha. Many people in this world are afraid of ghosts, but aren't all ghosts just dreams that people long to see but can't? What are they seeing? Haven't they woken up yet? Let them stay here. They won't be of any use in the next level anyway. Sick Master Lu, please wait for me. WWH Why are you looking at me like that, Sick Master Lu? Is there something on my face? Nothing, let's go. Okay. It's the sixth level now. Are you still going to follow me? This sixth level is called Purgatory. It's guarded by the spirit of the 15th Sword Saint. Because he awakened the fire spirit during his lifetime, it got this name. Legend has it that even though she's just a spirit, she's still at the seventh realm. I see, that's interesting. I clearly remember Lu Yu saying just now that he didn't know any information about the levels after the fourth one. Interesting. It's very hot. The fire spirit of the 15th Sword Saint is no joke. Sick Master Lu, look quickly, that's the spirit of the 15th Sword Saint. She's very powerful, you must be very careful. Yes, I know. I'd better stay far away and not get caught in the crossfire. So you're the challenger. Junior, Lu Chauga of the M.O. Sect, please let the Sword Saint instruct me. Hmm. You're indeed at the sixth realm. I'm no match for you. You pass. Thank you, senior. How could this be? Why didn't she fight and just surrendered? This guy has ruined my plans. You, 
Are you going to continue following me? Absolutely. Protecting the safety of the Sect Master is my duty. This seventh level should be the deepest part of the Sword Prison, right? What's inside? This seventh level is called Endless. Countless evil spirits slain by the Sword Masters of all generations are imprisoned here. The evil energy accumulated in this place is extremely strong. If you can pass this level, you will be truly tempered, and your future chances of breaking through the six realms will increase by at least 70%. How did you know all this? It's recorded in the Black Bamboo Forest. Just a little reading is enough. Oh no, he's trying to trick me. Oh? I heard that except for the Sword Master lineage, no one else can enter the Black Bamboo Forest at will. How did you read about it? One to one remember. Last time I went to the Black Bamboo Forest to ask the Sword Master, I took a look by the way while the Sword Master wasn't there at that time. I'm old, and I forget things easily, he. Well, let's go to the last level as soon as possible. You you should be there. Phew. I have to stay calm, my chance will come eventually. Such a strong killing intent endless, no wonder this seventh level is called endless. Where is you you? That meditating figure, it looks like you you, right? It really is him. Although the killing intent is strong, the feeling of spiritual energy has not changed. This guy everyone outside is going crazy looking for him, but he's just sitting here meditating. As long as we take him out, this problem will be over. Kill. Kill. How noisy. Who is that person? Why can't even those two giant spirits harm him? How terrifying. He's more terrifying than us. Could he be the current sword master? That brat he's even learned to look at people with his back like me. When he wakes up, I'll have to knock his askew head. You, you, wake up. The purifying mantra doesn't work. He has become one of us. You can't take him away. He killed the giant spirits, but he's no match for us either. You should stay too and become one of us. You sword cultivators should taste the flavor of being without a physical body. It's the four evil beasts. If they attack together, even a seventh realm cultivator wouldn't stand a chance. If they were alive, they could even kill an eighth realm cultivator. Kill that kid quickly and let him know the ferocity of this place. The more trash goes up to wear down Lu Chauga, the better, he he he. Annoying trash. You you. This. This is the power of a fire spirit. Isn't Lu Chauga a water spirit? What the hell happened inside? So, you weren't trapped in this place. You trapped yourself. Yes, I've been waiting for you. I lost, in the fifth level, I lost to your illusion. That was the only time I lost. You. Your face. What, you don't like my appearance now? But I like it very much. I feel like I've entered a state of unprecedented comfort. What's the point of justice, morality, and protecting the world? If you can't win, what's the point? As long as I defeat you, it's more fun than anything else. This kid is completely possessed by his inner demons. We have to wake him up. I must defeat you. If you don't come to your senses, I'll beat you until you do.